Web novel fanfiction TG the good. The latest of the latest. Chapter 1 The second class of the third year is going to the training hall to participate in the professional awakening ceremony, pay attention to order, random activities during the professional awakening will be disqualified from the professional awakening. The head teachers and teachers in charge of each class, please organize the students' career awakening work in an orderly manner. At Yuntong Middle School, the radio rang again, and the atmosphere in the classroom became extremely tense. Holy shit, so fast. We've already reached the second shift, so we will be next. No, poker, my legs are so weak, you, you say that if I don't wake up, my dad will scrape me alive. Jing Mu heard the chattering voices from the side, even though he was also clenching his fists nervously at the moment, he still rolled his eyes casually. Maybe Uncle Kai will throw you into a cement pool and into the foundation of a certain building. Hearing this, Kai Shinkuan, who is Zheng Mu's best friend, immediately shut up and pointed at Zheng Mu with a trembling hand. It took a long while before a sentence was squeezed out between his teeth. Don't pretend, you don't usually have shaking legs, look at you now, it looks like you have Parkinson's. Humph, since the catastrophe hundreds of years ago, Blue Star has become a world dominated by professionals and monsters. If the 18-year-old awakening ceremony fails to obtain the occupation bestowed by heaven and becomes a professional, then this life will be over. I don't believe that you, the top student in Yuntong Middle School who has won the first place every year, is not nervous about your future. It doesn't depend on whether you study well or not. Zheng Mu was also silent when he heard the words. Indeed, even if I was reborn into this world and experienced another 18 years of new life, I still feel apprehensive when facing such a major event. In these 18 years, he himself has not only become a school bully in the eyes of his classmates. In the same way, I have also seen too many seniors who are academic masters. During the awakening ceremony at the age of 18, they didn't even get a life job, and they were denied by God for a lifetime. Zheng Mu has his own understanding of the world. Blue Star's current situation is similar to an online game world. As for the professionals, they are the players of this world. The specific occupation type of a professional is determined by God. Mainly divided into three categories. Combat professions, the cliché warrior, mage, archer, assassin. Auxiliary occupations, priest, array mage, beast tamer and basically stay in the main city all the time, and rarely go to the wilderness for life and occupation. Pharmacists, blacksmiths, appraisers, etc. Of course, under the same occupation, there will also be some extremely rare booster occupations. Once such people appear, they will immediately become the darlings of all major forces. And there are almost no common professionals who can leave a name in the history of Blue Star's professionals. More than 80% are all rare buff jobs. These augmented occupations have much stronger skill trees and skill systems than common occupations. As long as you don't make waves in the early stage, you will lead the audience in various ways in the later stage. While the thoughts were churning, the radio rang again. The awakening ceremony of the second class of the third year ended soon, and finally it was Zheng Mu's turn. Everyone lined up and came out of the classroom in an orderly manner. At this moment, Zheng Mu felt like he was rushing from the prison to the execution ground. Ah! Stop him quickly! Just as he walked downstairs, a sudden sharp exclamation came from upstairs. Zheng Mu felt an afterimage suddenly flash in front of him, and the next moment, a figure suddenly appeared downstairs, and in the arms of that person, at this moment, he just caught a student who jumped off the building. Kai Xinkuan grabbed the corner of Zheng Mu's clothes nervously. This kind of situation, I thought I was numb after seeing it too much, but when it really happened to my body this year, I still felt a sense of suffocation coming from my body. That person obviously failed to awaken. Okay, don't look around, and put your mind right. Even if you fail to awaken, you still have a great youth. The sound of common people is not necessarily black and white. Most of us are common people. Su Qinguang, the warrior professional head teacher in class 3 with a strength of level 39 and who can easily jump up to 3 floors, said loudly. 
However, this kind of persuasion with different identities obviously does not have much effect at this moment. Soon, everyone looked at the faces of all beings in silence, and walked into the gymnasium. There are no so-called speeches with a bright future in sight, and there are no grand ceremonial performances. There were only Long Guo in charge of the professional union in Yuntong City, as well as senior officials from the education department and the school, sitting in a row. First, Liang Hai. Zheng Mu's eyes flashed, this person was considered excellent in the class, and his physical fitness was also outstanding. However, when this classmate named Liang Hai walked up to the awakening crystal tall and straight, he put his hand on it. After five full minutes, there was no response. Zheng Mu and his classmates have seen the cruelty of the awakening ceremony. No. Teacher, give me some more time, I can awaken, I will definitely be able to, I. Liang Hai was taken away by two soldiers who were not surprised, one on the left and the other on the right. While the desperate shouts were still reverberating in the gymnasium, the staff had already coldly called out the next name. Next, Lu Dashen. A few minutes later, a burst of light finally came from the awakening crystal. Lu Dashen, combat class, D-class warrior, common class. Even though it was only a common occupation, the lowest existence among professionals, there was a burst of envious congratulations from the team below at this moment. Awakened. The warrior profession, although it is only at the common level, the warrior group is very large. As long as you work hard, it will not be a problem to become a local civil servant in the future. It's really a trick of luck. An excellent person like Liang Hai failed to awaken, but Lu Dashen, who sleeps and skips classes every day, unexpectedly succeeded in awakening. This life will be very different from now on. Hush, be quiet, we haven't awakened yet, if we offend him at this time. After a brief discussion, after several awakening failures, and the awakening of the common profession. The name of Zheng Mu's best friend, Kai Xingkuan, was finally called out. The latter walked up nervously, and as soon as he put his hand on the awakening crystal, a burst of different brilliance immediately emanated from it. Ha! Huh. There's a buff job out so soon. The staff and the professionals sitting in their seats all looked over one after another. Kai Shinkuan, a combat profession, a B-rank golden gun shooter, an augmented profession of a combat professional gunslinger. Ha ha ha. Poker. My TM is actually a job booster. B-level. Kai Shinkuan excitedly waved and shouted to Zheng Mu in the audience. Zheng Mu also immediately smiled and gave him congratulatory applause. Kai Xinkuan's future is bound to be bright, B-level occupations, let alone Yuntong City, even the entire Heijing County can make a difference. Just as Kai Xinkuan was receiving congratulations from the school leaders, Zheng Mu's name finally rang out. Chapter 2 Next Zheng Mu Zheng Mu took a deep breath and walked to the stage under the eyes of everyone. Pressed one hand on the awakening crystal. He was not given too much time to be nervous, just a few seconds later, a burst of bright streamer erupted from the top of the awakening crystal. Awakened. Zheng Mu's eyes widened in surprise, and then, like his classmates and Kai Xinkuan, he looked at the staff beside him. However, the expression on the latter's face quickly became strange after a brief surprise. After deliberating for a while, he finally looked at Jing Mu with a complicated expression and nodded. Successful awakening. Jing Mu, special occupation, A level mechanic. Suddenly, there was an uproar at the scene. Fuck. Grade A, isn't that a proper seedling from Xingqing and Tianbei University? Ah, uh, ah, uh, don't give people a way to live, Xueba, school grassroots, plus A level professionals, this fucking doesn't give us a way to survive. Hey, does anyone have the contact information of Zheng Mu? There was a lot of discussion among the crowd, but soon someone seemed to have discovered something. No, special occupation. Shouldn't it be an augmentation occupation? The profession of a mechanic, do you remember what is the increase of the common profession? Eh. In the job encyclopedia, I don't seem to have seen it in the increase column of the mage class. I don't remember warrior's booster career. The crowd was chattering, but Zheng Mu, who was standing on the stage, had a bluish face, clenched his fists, and was speechless. 
Class A career. Although it is not as good as the top S level profession, it can be said to be the pride of heaven. However, he happened to meet a mechanic. As a top student and a person reborn in this world, he has already memorized the professional encyclopedia by heart, and among them, the existence of a mechanic, he remembers very clearly. The audience was discussing whether this profession is an increase of that profession, but no one knew. Mechanic, which does not belong to any common occupational buff. Mechanic, alone, is a profession. It can even be said to be a system. However, only those who have understood this so-called system can understand how fucked it is. People who only know the surface of a mechanic will definitely shout loudly when they see the other party's information at first glance, half-step S rank. Class A Career HP and MP are bound to the creator's mechanical body. If the mechanical body's energy and durability survive, the mechanic will never die. It can not only fight, but also assist, and can also make mechanical creations as life occupations. Like an S-level professional with an A-level label. However, Zheng Mu already knew the sinkhole of this profession. First of all, apart from the equipment and weapons produced by fighting monsters in this world, all the creations made by professionals have a strict review process of the way of heaven. If it does not meet the standard, not only will it not have any attributes at all, but it will not be able to be used as a prop. And as a mechanic who has a great dependence on mechanical objects, first manufacturing a mechanical body that can be recognized by the heavens has already strangled the throat of this profession. Then, the undead feature that sounds pretty wow. As long as the mechanical creation is not destroyed, the mechanic is equivalent to immortality. However, there is a big sinkhole here. In addition to the blood volume and energy tied to death, the mechanic also has a special attribute that other professions do not have. Computing power. Similar to the performance of a computer. The mechanical creation of a mechanic requires computing power, and the learning of its own skills also requires a lot of computing power. Moreover, unlike other professionals, the skill release limit is only MP, and the skill usage of the mechanic also has a skill cooldown time. Think about it. As long as other professionals have enough skill books and meet the learning requirements of this profession, they can theoretically have countless skills. And as long as the MP is enough, it can be released infinitely. And the mechanics. Originally limited by computing power, there are only a few skills that can be learned. In the end, it will take tens of minutes, or even hours, or days of cooling time to release it once. It is completely blocking the way of future development. It is not easy for mechanical creations to be recognized by the Tao of Heaven, and the skills of the skill tree are more restrictive than one. Tune in and don't get discouraged. Zheng Mu walked aside with blank eyes. Under the sympathetic and regretful eyes of the leaders, he registered his information and returned to the team again. The class teacher Su Qingguang patted him on the shoulder and said something comforting. He just nodded numbly. The students on the side were puzzled after seeing Zheng Mu's reaction. Some people carefully took out their mobile phones and began to search the professional encyclopedia. Soon, Zheng Mu was able to keenly perceive the gazes around him. Shocked, sorry, gloating, sympathetic, happy. The ivory tower of this world has long since become less pure due to the existence of professional awakening. Kai Xingkuan didn't think of any comforting words in the end, he could only silently pat Jing Mu on the shoulder and stay by his side. Jing Mu has the nickname Poker because he is a schoolgirl with a cold face to those girls who take the initiative. However, Kai Xingkuan, who grew up with Jing Mu, knows how powerful his best friend is deep in his heart. He firmly believes that Jing Mu can definitely think of a way to break the situation. Zhang Chenglong, successfully awakened, Sirank Steel Knight. Lu Gu, successfully awakened, D-class common assassin. Jiang Kuan, the awakening failed. As the names were read out one by one, everyone in the class soon completed the awakening process. Under the leadership of the head teacher Su Qingguang, he returned to the classroom. On the way, seeing the students awakening to their careers, they happily called up their own career panel, and Zheng Mu finally called out his own panel by silently chanting. However, before the light curtain on the panel appeared, a voice suddenly sounded. The activation of the trigger condition of the host is detected, 
and the Dimensional Creation System is officially launched. Chapter 3 The activation of the trigger condition of the host is detected, and the Dimensional Creation System is officially launched. System Sitting in his seat, the students around him who had successfully awakened were all looking towards him with vague eyes. Zheng Mu naturally knew what these people were thinking. I'm afraid it won't be long, and it can even be said that right now, he, the top student of Yuntong Middle School, has awakened a very tasteless profession, and it has already spread in the school. However, at this moment, Zheng Mu could no longer care about the reactions of the people around him. At this moment, I anxiously felt the long-awaited voice in my mind. Almost self-taught, Zheng Mu called directly in his heart. System, hurry up, let me introduce your functions, my mother has been waiting for you for eighteen years. Zheng Mu was both surprised and delighted at the moment, and he had already pinned all his hopes of turning his career around on the long-overdue system. However, the system did not disappoint him. This system is a dimensional creation system. According to the host's current awakening occupation, it can provide the host with mechanical creation blueprints that can be recognized by the world's heaven. All the prototypes of mechanical creations come from the host's previous world's film and television, animation, novels and other fantasy works. The host only needs to collect complete materials to manufacture. The system's answer made Zheng Mu clench his fists excitedly. This action, in the eyes of the students around him, was an act of anger. Yo, it looks like our Zheng Shuaba heard it, but I'm sorry, I think I really didn't say anything wrong, right? Zheng Mu came back to his senses, frowned and looked in the direction of the voice. But the person who spoke was Zhang Chenglong, who was at odds with him in the class, and a cousin whose family was said to have a professional background. On weekdays, he can't pee with a bully like Zheng Mu at all, and he is a real scumbag. However, today's opponent was obviously a turned surf who sang. The sea level professional level is not high, but it is enough to play in the small place of Yuntong City. Not to mention, the night profession itself is a highly adaptable and demanding profession. The major professional teams, professional associations, groups, etc. are probably ready to throw olive branches to each other at this moment. However, Zheng Mu had no joy or sorrow on his face at the moment, Kai Xingkuan, his best friend, couldn't stand it anymore. Stand up with a bang. Fuck you, do you really think you've got a job as a shitty steel plate knight? and you're treating yourself as a master. Believe it or not, I didn't even give you the chance to take the college entrance examination. Damn. My brother is also what a guy of your level can say. As soon as Kai Shinkuan opened his mouth, the classroom became completely silent in an instant. The Kai family is not considered a big family in Yuntong City. However, the Kai family in Yuntong City itself is just a branch. Not to mention that Kai Shinkuan has now awakened to a B-level profession, in the future, the branch of the Kai family in Yuntongcheng will definitely be able to get more resources from above. With the Kai family's own strength alone, it would be easy to deal with him, a C-level professional who has not yet grown up. Before Jing Mu had time to stop him, Kai Shinkuan had already walked in front of the other party with a step of disbelief. Under everyone's shocked gaze, Zhang Chenglong was slapped directly on the face. The crisp sound was very clear in the classroom at this moment. Zhang Chenglong's whole face turned red in an instant. However, at this moment, he was facing Kai Xinkuan who was standing in front of him with a provocative expression, and even took the initiative to move his face closer to him. But he didn't even have the guts to open his mouth to curse. Humph. Damn, you can't grasp the opportunity given to you. Seeing this, Kai Shinkuan slapped each other's faces one by one. Amid the crackling sound, everyone else in the classroom fell silent. Okay, Chi Kuan, there's no need to get your hands dirty with this kind of person. When Zheng Mu's voice sounded, Kai Shinkuan let out a cold snort and stopped slowly. Zheng Mu walked in front of Zhang Chenglong who dared not speak out, his face did not show the slightest despair and decadence due to lack of professionalism, and he was still as confident as before. I know what you think, but don't you think it's stupid to bark aimlessly like a mad dog when you don't have the ability to crush the enemy casually? No matter how unpopular a mechanic is, that's a proper A-level, right? As far as I know, people like me are very welcome in the professional military academies in the Dragon Kingdom. 
As he spoke, Jin Mu shook his head, ignoring the other party's livid face. He grabbed his backpack and walked out of the classroom. Ji Kuen, by the way, I haven't skipped school yet. It's the last day of graduation, so I can't leave any regrets. Hearing this, Kai Shin Kuen immediately grabbed his bag happily, and followed Jing Mu to run outside. He didn't even look at Zhang Chenglong's glasses full of resentment behind him at this moment. School Entrance Poker, are you going to sign up for the military academy? This is really a good way. Hey, my old man is from the army. I will talk to him when the time comes, and he will definitely be willing to help you. Jing Mu rolled his eyes. Did you forget that my dad is also from the army, but don't worry about it. I'm not going to the military academy. I just said it casually. Zheng Mu looked at Kai Xinkuan, who had become much more energetic since his professional awakening, and smiled slightly. I'm going to apply for Xingqing University. As he spoke, ignoring Kai Xinkuan's expression, Zheng Mu stopped a car on the side of the road and got into it. I need to prepare well these days, Jikuan, will see you in a month's recruitment exam. You have to practice leveling quickly in this month, otherwise you will be overtaken by me, a weak mechanic, and you will be ashamed. Kai Xinkuan looked at Zheng Mu who left, and after a brief astonishment on his face, he finally felt relieved. Growing up together, the feeling Zheng Mu gave him has never been missed. Although he didn't know how Zheng Mu came up with the way to break the situation, he was sure that he, a brother with a higher heart than the sky, definitely didn't just talk about it casually. Holy Qin University, TSK TSK, it seems that the Silver Party plan will be postponed again. In the car. After reporting the address to the driver, Zheng Mu immediately closed his eyes, pretending to be asleep. In fact, it has already communicated with the system in his mind. System, now that you are finally bound, do you want to give me some newbie gift pack or something? Otherwise there would be no mechanical creations, and my profession would have absolutely no fighting power. Ding, host, please rest assured, the novice gift package has been issued for you. You can immediately draw a rare level construction blueprint, and since it is a novice reward, the system will provide the materials required for the construction of this blueprint, except for the main body, for free. Drawing has been started for you. Sitting in the car, Zheng Mu didn't even have time to react, and the system immediately started the extraction. Congratulations to the host, you have obtained the rare level blueprint Transformers Optimus Prime. Zheng Mu, fuck. Optimus Prime. System, you let me drive this thing and hang out in Xinxiu village, isn't it a bit too bullying? Chapter, 4 Zheng Mu's family in this life is not complete. After he was born, his mother hadn't seen her since she opened her eyes. For 18 years, Zheng Zhan, the father of this world, raised him. And the latter's selfless devotion also allowed Zheng Mu, a soul from another world, to break through that ideological barrier, and he willingly called him father. Dad, I've successfully awakened. As for A-level, I'm a mechanic by profession. Ha ha ha, if you're still here, you might be scratching your head before you have time to enjoy yourself, right? In a small dilapidated building, Zheng Mu lit a few sticks of incense and put them in the incense burner in front of him. The portrait of an honest and resolute middle-aged man was placed in front of the stage, who was Zheng Mu's father in this life. A year ago, because he received a transportation order across the wilderness, he was attacked by a monster on the way. When he came back, he was poisoned and could not be saved. Because Zheng Mu has a mature soul, he has been a good boy in the eyes of the neighbors since he was a child. However, Zheng Mu watched helplessly as his cheap father in this life, from a shabby young man, took responsibility step by step and became a middle-aged man. Dad, you were worried that I would be bullied when you left, but this time, my son may really need your protection. Zheng Mu murmured, and sadly took out a bunch of dusty keys from the drawer. Hualong FAW 389 truck. It was his father's car when he was alive. According to him, this old man accompanied him in the wilderness for more than twenty times, leaving some scars on his body more or less each time. I don't know if it's a coincidence but this type of truck is almost exactly the same as the prototype of Optimus Prime except that it doesn't have the cool paint in the movie. System, there are a lot of scars on the body, if it is the main body, will it affect it? 
After scanning, no functional damage was found, it can be directly used as the main body of Optimus Prime. After the manufacturing is completed, the damaged parts will be automatically repaired. Do you want to start assembly? Hearing this, Zheng Mu took a deep breath and nodded heavily. Establish. As soon as the words fell, the next moment, the huge truck was immediately enveloped by a whirling light. While slowly flying up, accompanied by a mechanical sound of clicking, it was directly disassembled on the spot. Fire seed source body energy core, loaded. Reparable silicon based structure, loaded. Battle intelligence program Optimus Prime, loaded. Weapon System Hot Melting Knife, Loaded. Weapon System Cannon, Loaded. Amidst the voices, the bright purple light was dazzling and magnificent, making Zheng Mu feel a little uncomfortable, but he still stared at the truck in the light without blinking. With the light dispersed. Gone is the truck full of bruises and dust, replaced by a cool truck with red and blue flame paint. Hiss. The romance of this man made Zheng Mu gasp in excitement. Before he could react, the professional panel, which had always been ordinary, suddenly popped up on its own initiative. Mechanic Zheng Mu detected, building a qualified mechanical creation, using binding. The next moment, messages about Optimus Prime appeared in front of Zheng Mu in the form of a panel. Name, Transformers Optimus Prime. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Zheng Mu. Level, Purple Rare Level. Durability, 100100. Attack power, 150 to 100. Defense power, 800. Skill 1, transformation, can transform from car form to Autobot form, no cooldown time. Skill 2, melt knife attack, use the melt knife to attack the target, the damage is huge, cooling time, 20 minutes. Skill 3, cannon launch, long range attack on the target, causing a lot of damage, ammunition load, 20 rounds. Skill 4, Silicon-based life, after the battle, it can slowly repair the damaged parts. Skill 5, Super Intelligence, Optimus Prime has independent intelligence, does not occupy the calculation space of mechanics, and has the ability to group me to deal with it. Explode. The blue veins on Jing Mu's excited forehead were bulging, it's true that he didn't have any heart disease. Otherwise, at this moment, he would probably lie on the ground with a squeak. If this information about Optimus Prime is exposed to the outside world, it will definitely cause an uproar in the entire Blue Star. This will be a big reversal of the poor cognition of the mechanic profession. Zheng Mu looked at the information on his professional panel, the gleaming LV-1 must not be faked. However, at such a level, he now has a monster boss mechanical creation like Optimus Prime as his driving force. Most importantly, Optimus Prime has the ability to act on its own and does not occupy the computing power of Zheng Mu, a mechanic. This also means that Zheng Mu can learn more skills in the early stage. Thinking of this, Zheng Mu didn't bother to exchange pleasantries with his mechanical creation. He directly called up his professional panel. Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, Class A Mechanic. Level, LV10100. HP, 100100. MP, 100100. Computing power, 0100. Strength, 8. Agility, 7. Spiritual power, 10. Constitution, 7. Skill, none, skill 3 can be learned currently. Mechanical creation, Transformers Optimus Prime. The eye-catching career panel made the Kam Zheng Mu look as happy as a teenager. This world is set like an online game, and now that he has successfully awakened, the huge world and the deeper source of power are all within his reach. Ambition already arises without any reason at this moment. With such a profession, coupled with the system assistance that infinitely compensates for my shortcomings, it is not impossible for me to take a look at the top of the world. Zheng Mu muttered, after a short period of calm, he finally called out his own skill tree. Chapter, 5 The skill trees of different professions are also hugely different. When Zheng Mu opened the skill tree panel, a dense tree diagram appeared in front of him. Taking a quick look, Zheng Mu was shocked to find that, except for the completely dark part behind, 
there were more than 300 skills displayed in front of him. In terms of the number of skills alone, mechanics are definitely no worse than other professions. However, the damn computing power strictly limits this advantage. Shaking his head slightly, Zheng Mu didn't look too high at those skills that were extremely far away from him. On the panel, there are not many skills unlocked at the current level, only three. Battle Analysis LV1, it can calculate the opponent's attack path 100 milliseconds before the enemy target attacks in advance, without cooling time. Computing power occupied, 10. Zheng Mu was just about to be happy, but when he saw the clear millisecond unit above, his heart turned cold. 100 milliseconds. This is also called advance. Isn't that just one tenth of a second? In such a short period of time, I couldn't even blink. Look down. Weapon proficiency max, you can use weapons and equipment from other professions, but you cannot use and learn the skills of the corresponding profession, and there is no cooldown time. Computing power occupied, 20. This skill is one of the reasons why the mechanic is considered a combat, support and life amphibious occupation. In other professions, warrior and assassin cannot use even if they get a mage artifact. The power of thermal weapons that are not approved by the Tao of Heaven is infinitely weakened, but weapons such as firearms that are approved by the Tao of Heaven can only be used by gunners, killers and other professions. However, this limitation is here for Zheng Mu, so don't worry about it. Learn directly without hesitation. The last learnable skill. Golden Hand LV1, it can transform monster materials, or materials and other items that do not exceed the green excellent level into mechanical components with similar properties. Cooling time, 24H. Computing power occupied, 50. My mother. Zheng Mu was speechless, no wonder the profession of a mechanic is so tasteless. D-level common occupations, as long as they have some attack skills such as slashing at the beginning, even auxiliary occupations and life occupations have combat skills in the early stage. None of my three skills are directly used in combat. It's really putting all the pressure on the mechanical creation. Shaking his head speechlessly, Zheng Mu couldn't say anything, hesitated for a while, and even studied battle analysis. Now the level is low, as long as I go out of the city to the wilderness, kill monsters, and get enough experience points, I can upgrade my skills. After the upgrade, there must be more time to predict the battle analysis in advance. Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, Class A Mechanic. Level, LV10100. HP, 100100. MP, 100100. Computing Power, 80100. Strength, 6. Agility, 5. Spiritual Power, 8. Constitution, 7. Skills, Combat Analysis LV1, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV1. Mechanical Creation, Transformers Optimus Prime. One month after the professional awakening, all major colleges and universities will start recruitment trials. Among them, according to different occupation types, different institutions will have different requirements. But there is one thing, professional level is a very important indicator in the assessment of various colleges and universities. Even for the assessment and trial of life occupations, the level requires level 10. When Zheng Mu was sitting in the cockpit of Optimus Prime, he arrived at the checkpoint of Yuntong City without driving all the way. The edge of the square here is already full of people. The noisy voice was brutally poured into the ears. Golden Tooth Knights, all seven members, minimum level 20, good reputation, union registered four star fixed team, bring new awakened cute new. One person 250-00 dragon coins, two people start the car, pack over ten levels. Mage. Come on mage. What level 5? Go, go, the places we go are at least level 10 monster areas, take you to be your nanny. The royal hunting team is in urgent need of an experienced level 20 frontline melee fighter. It is required to register with the guild and have no bad records, and the combat power is above 3 stars. Newcomer Mage, is there someone who can guide me at 15W? I'm C-Level Flame Mage. 
Looking at this scene, Cheng Mu's eyes flashed with emotion when he heard the emotional voice of the online game. This is really a magical world. On the driveway where Zheng Mu was, Optimus Prime had a cool and eye-catching appearance, but it was only slightly more attractive. Soon, Zheng Mu passed the inspection. ID card, purpose of going out, estimated time of going out. Zheng Mu handed things over. I'm a newly awakened professional this year. I'm going out to try and upgrade. If it's time, it's about a month. One month. The soldier raised his head in surprise, and looked at the harmless Xing Mu in the cab at the moment. Shook his head. I advise you to be more sensible. Newcomers find some professionals to take you. Although it costs some money, it is at least safe. The soldier said casually, seeing that Xing Mu had no intention of repenting, he didn't say anything more. After quickly registering the information, Xing Mu was released. Looking at the truck driving out of the city, the soldier shook his head slightly. It's really fearless for those who don't know. Such a big truck target is like a living target in the wilderness, but there is only one person. The soldier sighed, as if he had seen an abandoned truck with broken bones in the cab in the wilderness of the future. Reacting similarly to the soldiers, there was also a team of professionals who had just left the city. Damn it, dare to go to the wilderness with such a big commotion, is this fucking dead? The sound of the engine is because I am afraid that I will attract fewer monsters. When I saw the cab just now, there seemed to be only one person, and he looked quite young. Humph, what's the use of being young? Let the monster praise the tenderness and juiciness of this meat. Chapter, 6 Zheng Mu doesn't care about the evaluation of the outside world. If it weren't for the fact that the Optimus Prime under his seat was too shocking, the rash exposure might attract the covetousness of some forces that he couldn't deal with. Zheng Mu directly let Optimus Prime go out of the city in a transformed posture. In that case, his name would probably have spread in Dragon Country, and even Blue Star that day. The roar of Optimus Prime's engine erupted unscrupulously in the wilderness. The speed of the car was not slow, and it was driving fast without any scruples towards the depths of the wilderness. At the beginning, we could see quite a few teams along the way. They were fighting with some teams such as mutated rats and poisonous pythons. Optimus Prime, keep driving and go straight to our destination. Lying leisurely on the chair in the cab, Zheng Mu said lightly. The next moment, a voice with an obvious metallic synthetic tone came from the radio in the cab. Order received. Spreading out a wilderness map bought for 30 yuan, Zheng Mu stared at several places on the map that he had circled. Before he set off, he had already thought about the arrangements for the next period of time. Optimus Prime has a fairly good battery life, and his health points have also been bound to the mechanical creations. As long as the mechanical creations under his command do not die, he is an immortal existence. But this time, he brought a lot of food and daily necessities with him. Let alone a month, there is no need to worry about staying in the wilderness for two or three months. And in order to upgrade himself as quickly as possible without Optimus Prime being exposed in advance. Zheng Mu immediately thought of the place where the monsters gathered. Venomous ruins, corpse town and night beast forest. In these three places, monsters have the highest level and even exceed level 20. For other novice professionals, they are places that absolutely dare not set foot. However, for Zheng Mu, it is a treasure land for several upgrades to become stronger. Soon, with a sudden sharp wail, Zheng Mu, who was lying in the cockpit and almost fell asleep, suddenly opened his eyes. He was very familiar with this voice. Venomous Cat Demon Through the glass, Zheng Mu saw the black shadow that was knocked out and rolled several times on the ground at a glance. The black shadow was about one meter long. Its body was that of a stinking big cat with fried fur, but its face had a distorted human face. The picture is pretty good. The other party's information also appeared in front of Zheng Mu's eyes immediately. Name, Vicious Cat Demon. Race, Spirit. Level, LV8. HP, 122450. MP, 3003000. Strength, 11. Agility, 15. Spiritual Power, 8. 
Constitution, 10. Skills, Bite LV2, Poison LV1, Intimidate LV1. Looking at the strangely twisted four legs, which was obviously a cat demon that was broken by Optimus Prime, Xing Mu looked strange. What is this, we haven't done anything yet, you bumped into it yourself, and then you turned into this ghostly look. TSK TSK TSK, you can't just have courage in Pengxi. Zheng Mu shook his head, looking at the surrounding ruins similar to the photos in the book, he knew that the poisonous ruins had arrived. Immediately, he put a backpack on his back, held a sharp LV-1 training long knife in his hand, and opened the car door. Optimus Prime. Transform. As soon as Jing Mu got out of the car, he saw a few prostrate figures in the fog in front of him, with a strange arc at the corner of his mouth, and said calmly. The next moment, the huge Optimus Prime truck behind him suddenly started shaking. Amidst the cool and pleasant sound of metal collisions, a giant robot with a height of 8, 5 meters, red and blue, appeared on the ruins. Before a few cat demons rushed over, Optimus Prime had already raised one foot abruptly. Boom! Zheng Mu, who was not too far away, could clearly feel a tremor under his feet. Before he could react, a voice sounded in his mind. You killed the poisonous cat demon LV-10, you got 96 experience points. Looking at the panel, the column representing experience points changed from empty to nearly full in an instant. Zheng Mu opened his mouth in delight. Before he could utter a sigh, the next moment, Optimus Prime's heavy metal fist hit a cat demon scurrying around on the ground. The latter instantly turned into a puddle of mud. You killed the fluorescent cat demon LV-9, and got 77 experience points. You have upgraded. Current level LV-2. A warm current suddenly emerged from his body, and the next moment, Zheng Mu was keenly aware of the changes in his body, and looked at his personal panel. All attributes have been increased by two points. Even the computing power that he cares most about has been increased from the original maximum of 100 points to 120 points. Ha ha ha. Cool. That's it, Optimus Prime, kill them all. Understood, Lord Master. Optimus Prime agreed in a low voice, and the next moment, his huge body was like a flexible monkey. Quickly and ruthlessly, he stomped or smashed them, and killed several cat demons one after another. You killed the poisonous cat demon LV-9, you got 80 experience points. You killed the cat demon LV-6, you got 41 experience points. You killed the fluorescent cat demon LV-11, and got 88 experience points. You killed the cat demon LV-9, you got 72 experience points. You kill. You have upgraded. Current level LV-3. Looking at the messy battle scene around him, Zheng Mu was so excited that he couldn't speak. How long has it been since you got out of the car? Have five minutes. But he has been promoted two levels in a row. LV3 wants to upgrade and needs a full 400 experience points. However, Zheng Mu doesn't mean to worry at all. Upgrading, for him now, is simply too easy. Levels can't bring him much combat power, what he needs are more mechanical creations. Chapter, 7. Blue Star Tian Dao itself is relatively friendly to the early development of professionals. At least, the monster area near the city is basically a place for newcomers to grow up, which can be said to be similar to the novice village in the game. However, this kind of friendliness is absolutely impossible like Xing Mu is now. In a few minutes, he even went up two levels. The children of Chables or powerful families, although they have mature professional support, lead them to upgrade in the wilderness. However, this behavior will be regarded as a team state by Tian Dao by default, and the experience points that should have been obtained by one person will be distributed to other people in the team. Therefore, team upgrade can only say that the security has been greatly improved, but it is really not necessarily true how much the upgrade speed has been improved. Optimus Prime strode rumblingly, walking among the ruins in this wilderness. The huge movement, like a bucket of blood poured into the sea, instantly attracted a large number of sharks. Meow. Amidst the sharp roar, Zheng Mu suddenly felt a gust of wind blowing behind him. A rollover of immediate conditioned reflex. Pooh. There was a burning pain from the back, and a hideous tear was torn from the clothes. 
With one blow, the vicious cat demon with LV-12 showed a cruel smile on his distorted face. However, when the other party looked down at his sharp claws, he was obviously taken aback. The blood that should have been imagined did not appear. And Zheng Mu, who should have been hit hard by it, grinned at the moment, but didn't mean to be hurt at all, and stood up on the spot. Boom! Then, without waiting for the cat demon to figure out what was going on. Optimus Prime, who saw Zheng Mu being attacked, had already raised an arm. A scorching yellow light emanated from the huge barrel, and the next moment the cannon exploded at the position of the cat demon. In the smoke and dust, except for a large pit more than one meter deep on the ground, not even a hair of the cat demon can be seen. You killed the poisonous cat demon LV-12, you got 141 experience points. The killing information floated in front of his eyes, Jing Mu glanced at the deep hole in the ground sympathetically, and shook his head. Although quite satisfied with his situation, Zheng Mu still found a problem that needs to be focused on. In the attack just now, because he was bound to Optimus Prime's HP and MP, his own attack fell on him. As a result, Optimus Prime's 100 durability was reduced by 10 points. These 10 points are nothing at all under the reply of Optimus Prime's skill silicon-based organisms. But it also reminded Zheng Mu. Mechanical creations can become the capital of his mechanic, but he, a mechanic, may sometimes become a burden to mechanical creations due to his own weakness. What if I was surrounded by a group of cat monsters just now? A group of cat demons submerged themselves under the crazy attack. A loss of 10 points or 10 points can still drag the mighty Optimus Prime into scrap iron. It seems that I have to make myself stronger as soon as possible. Not to mention that a person can come and go like the wind in the wilderness, at least I must have the ability to protect myself. Zheng Mu muttered, following Optimus Prime who was being slaughtered step by step, and walked towards the center of the ruins. The closer to the center, the higher the level of the cat demon. Not only that, but other monsters appeared. Name, Tumor Slime. Race, Elemental Body. Level, LV-10, LV-19. Skills, Corrosion LV-2, Physical Immunity LV-1, Elementalization LV-1. Name, Bone Face Wolf. Race, Beast. Skills, Bite LV-2, Rush LV-1, Call of the Same Kind LV-1. Any one of these monsters left in the wilderness of the novice area required newcomers to treat them with caution, or even give up fighting altogether and choose to flee. However, Zheng Mu glanced around, and there were at least twenty monsters in his sight. Moreover, looking at the bone-faced wolf howling up to the sky, more monsters will appear in a short time. At this moment, the sound of the system suddenly sounded. It is detected that the host has entered the center of the monster area venomous ruins, and the system releases a field-clearing task. Please clear all the monsters in the poisonous ruins within a week. Reward, Random Elite Blueprint 2 the sound of the system made Jing Mu's eyes light up. The blueprint level of the system is the same as the equipment level of professionals in this world. Similar to previous life online games. From low to high. White common, green excellent, blue elite, purple rare, red brave, orange legendary, and gold epic. As for whether there are any more, the system did not say, and Jing Mu did not ask. Elite blueprints, although not as good as the current Optimus Prime. However, as the weapon of my future mechanic, it can barely be justified, at least it won't be as shocking as Optimus Prime. One week. Hee <laughs> hee, it seems that there are quite a lot of poisonous ruins in stock. Muttering, Jing Mu immediately ordered Optimus Prime to put him on his body. At a height of 8 meters, I only need to grasp the position, and basically don't need to worry too much about safety. Roar. The monsters roared and rushed towards Optimus Prime. Zheng Mu, who was sitting on Optimus Prime's shoulder, also smiled ferociously. Shout out. Autobots. Attack. The next moment, the headlights at Optimus Prime's eyes suddenly lit up, and with a click on his left arm, a scorching yellow long knife suddenly protruded. The huge body is as flexible as a ballet dancer on the stage, an elegant turn and roundabout. The scorching hot melting knife is like a hot knife cutting butter, precisely sweeping across the monsters rushing around. Zheng Mu, 
who was sitting on Optimus Prime, on the panel in front of him, was immediately occupied by Barrage. You killed the poisonous cat demon LV-11, you got 97 experience points. You killed the bone-faced wolf LV-14, you got 255 experience points. You kill. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-4. Chapter, 8. You killed the poisonous cat demon LV-16, you got 197 experience points. You killed the bone-faced wolf LV-12, you got 89 experience points. You kill. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-8. The night is hazy, the wilderness in the dark night, and even the dense fog conveys a sense of terror and danger. Zheng Mu sat on Optimus Prime's shoulders. Before I knew it, I came here around noon, but I had been killing for more than ten hours. After more than ten hours of fighting, even Optimus Prime's durability dropped to around 800 due to the slow healing and battle damage. The twenty-round ammunition capacity of the cannon on his right arm was also emptied by half. The last ten rounds were requested by Zheng Mu, so I did not continue to use them. Illuminated by the two huge searchlights on the shoulders, the swarming monsters are like the tide of corpses in the previous zombie movies, and they can't be killed. They moved around and changed several battlefields. For this wilderness ruins, several mountains of corpses were left behind. As Zheng Mu's level gets higher and higher, the experience points obtained for killing these monsters are also getting less and less. You have new skills to learn. Zheng Mu frowned, and when he was considering whether to retreat for a while, a voice came from his mind. Click on the skill tree. Two shining skills have been unlocked. Fire Reset LV1, reset the ammunition of consumable weapons of all mechanical creations under your command, cooling time, 24H. Computing Power Occupied, 30. Computing Power Enhancement LV1, to a certain extent, reduce the computing power value consumed by skill learning, currently reduced by 10%. Computing Power Occupied, 50. Zheng Mu's pupils shrank. Almost without hesitation, he chose to learn the two skills. Every time you level up, you can get 20 more computing power. And now that he has upgraded to level 8, the maximum computing power has reached 240 points. Even after learning these two skills, the total consumption is only 160 points. However, these two skills can greatly improve their current situation. Optimus Prime's cannon is powerful, and it is a long-range weapon. It will kill a lot of monsters with one shot. In today's situation where monsters get together, it is a super killer. Not to mention the increase in computing power, as a mechanic, other skills can be omitted, this skill must not be missed. Optimus Prime, speed up, as long as we get to level 10, will kill these guys like melons and vegetables. Optimus Prime responded, and the movements of his hands increased. And with Jing Mu's permission, the deactivated cannon sounded again. Boom! As soon as the gun went down, a dozen or twenty monsters wailed one after another. Some were blown to pieces on the spot, and some had only half of their bodies left, entering a state of massive blood loss. After a while, it will become Jing Mu's experience points. At this moment, he was also staring at his panel nervously. The yellow light bar representing the experience points column is gradually getting longer, and the speed makes any professional look at it, and tears of envy will flow from his mouth. In the information about killing monsters one after another, there will also be some information about dropped items from time to time. Colorfully scattered all over the place. However, Zheng Mu didn't care about those things at all. If you are less than 10th level, the various attributes are not enough, so jump down to pick up things at this time. Zheng Mu is sure that he will be swallowed by the tide of monsters in an instant. Moreover, after reaching level 10, he can start to put experience points on skill upgrades with peace of mind. While upgrading your skills, you can quickly jump down from time to time to pick up a wave of loot. This is the monster spawning mode Zheng Mu hopes for. The killing went on into the second half of the night. During the period, when Zheng Mu was a little sleepy, he suddenly rose from level 8 to level 9. While the attribute was improved, his spirit was restored instantly. Just when the faint sunlight shone again in the midst of the poisonous ruins. Accompanied by a huge bone-faced wolf being cut in half by Optimus Prime. 
Zheng Mu, finally reached his small goal of level 10. It takes a day. You killed the elite bone face wolf LV-17, get 100 experience points, Blolv 10 Wolfbane Hand Crossbow. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-10. Finally level 10. Zheng Mu felt that his body was at least 4 or 5 times stronger than when he first left the city, and his eyes were full of excitement. The most intuitive change brought about by the improvement of various attributes of the body is. He can easily stand on Optimus Prime's shoulders, even if the latter makes a big attack, he doesn't have to worry about being thrown off. And, he can finally upgrade his skills with peace of mind. One hand grabbed a point of strength on Optimus Prime's shoulder, and below were the cat monsters, bone-faced wolves, and tumor slimes that were still swarming to attack. Click on the skill tree again. After reaching level 10, another skill in the skill tree was highlighted. Ordnance Transformation LV1, two weapons of the same type can be mechanized, while retaining the characteristics of the weapon, the shape can be independently designed to create a new weapon, with a cooling time of 24 hours. Computing power occupied, 30. Study. This skill made Zheng Mu's eyes extra bright. Although he has a long training knife in his hand, how can he appreciate this weapon? After mastering weapon proficiency max, there is no limit to him in the use of weapons. And now there is another ordnance transformation, which immediately made the appearance of weapons appear in Zheng Mu's mind. The sun shone through the mist on the central area of the poisonous ruins where ordinary people would never set foot, around seven or eight mountains of blood clotting corpses. White, green, and even sporadic blue light clusters are shining. Pick up any one here, even if it is of white quality, it can be sold for one or two thousand yuan in the market. TSK TSK TSK, what kind of Shura field for professionals, this is clearly my hunting ground for Zheng Mu. It's a treasure land of geomantic omen. Chapter, 9 Despite Optimus Prime's powerful combat power, Zheng Mu at this moment can not only rise to level 20 in one go. However, one month to upgrade to level 20, and it is still a tasteless profession like a mechanic. Zheng Mu could imagine with his toes that he would definitely be secretly investigated by some caring people. For the existence of Optimus Prime, it is better not to expose it in a short time. When there are people, because it is made by system blueprints, if Zheng Mu is not willing, even a professional with detection skills will definitely not be able to see it. This truck with a cool paint job is a terrifying mechanical creation. Under the cover of Optimus Prime, Zheng Mu jumped and rolled nimbly. Soon, among the trophies on the ground, the few blue elite items were brought up. Three pieces of equipment. Wolf Bane Hand Crossbow, LV-10, Blue Elite Level Weapon. When attacking, the target is affected by a slight poisoning effect. Equipped with crossbow bolts, 10. Note, this equipment requires gun proficiency, and crossbow bolts are proficient in professional use. Galileo Golden Revolver, LV-10, Blue Elite Level Weapon. It looks good, but it is a flashy gadget that hits the target and causes damage. Due to the erosion of the tumor slime, the appearance is not very good. Note, this equipment requires a gun proficiency professional to use. Explosive Slingshot, LV-10, Blue Elite Level Weapon. It can slowly self-synthesize projectiles with explosive effects, and cause slight explosion damage to the target after shooting. Note, this equipment requires gun proficiency and crossbow proficiency for professional use. LV-10's Blue Elite Weapon, according to Zheng Mu's understanding of the market. Basically, the price is more than 50 0, 0. It can be said that Zheng Mu has earned at least 150 0, 0 dragon coins in just one day out of the wilderness. Moreover, he still hasn't picked up the trophies of white and green. Although these three weapons are quite good for ordinary professionals, but I have the opportunity to get better weapons. Zheng Mu muttered, thinking of the skill introduction of ordnance modification that he had just activated. Immediately, I had a different thought. The location where they are now is indeed the central area of the poisonous ruins. Optimus Prime has been slaughtering for a day, and the melting knife with a 20-minute cooldown has been used many times. However, the surrounding cat monsters, bone-faced wolves, and tumor slimes seemed impossible to kill. 
Soon, one-fifth of the 5W experience points required for level LV10 upgrades has been completed. For example, when Zheng Mu is a novice, the activated skills upgrade does not require much experience. To upgrade from LV1 to LV2, 100 experience points are required. To upgrade from LV2 to LV3, 10, 0, 0 experience points are required. Seeing that experience points were enough to upgrade a skill, Zheng Mu clicked to upgrade Ordnance Transformation, without hesitation. Ordnance Transformation LV2, two weapons of the same type can be mechanized. While retaining the characteristics of the weapon, the shape can be independently designed to create a new weapon not tradable. The cooling time is 12 hours. Computing power occupied, 30. Ordnance Transformation LV3, it can mechanize weapons of no more than the same type. While retaining the characteristics of the weapon, it can design its own shape and make it into a new weapon tradable. The cooling time is 3 hours. Computing power occupied, 30. More than 10, 0, 0 points of experience go down. Seeing that he had upgraded to the most advanced of three skill attribute, Jing Mu burst out laughing on the spot. Isn't this a skill that can synthesize powerful weapons? Looking at the three pieces of equipment in his hands, Jing Mu chose to use them without hesitation. They are all long-range weapons, and they are all guns, which can be synthesized. In a burst of light, the three weapons were immediately attracted together by a ball of light. It was like being thrown into a rolling washing machine drum, accompanied by a crackling sound. The light dissipated, and two revolvers similar to the picture in Jing Mu's mind appeared in front of him. Twin Wolf Kiss, LV-10, Purple Rare Weapon, the work of mechanic Jing Mu, unlimited bullets, can quickly fire bullets with mild toxicity, causing a lot of damage to the target. Note, this equipment requires a professional gun proficiency to use. Looking at the hand, not only is the whole body yellow gold, but also a revolver with a wolf's head pattern on the gun body. Zheng Mu couldn't wait, and immediately stood on Optimus Prime's shoulder, pointed at a bone-faced wolf below, and pulled the trigger. Bang! 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 Three shots in a row. With the blessing of weapon proficiency max, although Zheng Mu cannot use specific skills like those gunner professionals. But the accuracy of using firearms is not bad at all. Three bullets hit the bone-faced wolf's eyebrows one after another. One smashed the bone between the opponent's eyebrows, the second pierced the eyebrows, and the third directly penetrated the skull. You killed the bone-faced wolf LV-12, you got 89 experience points. Ha ha ha, damn it! let me show you who is the father now. The disgusting feeling of being scratched by the cat demon before was released in an instant. Having been promoted to level LV-10, Zheng Mu now finally has some sense of participation in killing monsters. The whole person stood on Optimus Prime's shoulders. With this terrifying mechanical creation, the massacre of monsters in the poisonous ruins area was officially launched. Whenever the experience points are about the same, immediately choose to upgrade skills. It takes a lot of time and energy for others to upgrade a skill, but for Zheng Mu, a newcomer who has only been awakened for a few days, it seems as easy as drinking water and eating. The attack power of the kiss of two wolves is actually not high. After all, Zheng Mu does not have the skill blessing of a professional gunman, and at this moment he is just relying on the advantage of the opponent's unlimited bullets. Common attack on surrounding monsters. You killed the tumor slime LV11, get 97 experience points, blow 10 slime backpack. You killed the bone face wolf LV14, you got 125 experience points. You killed the poisonous cat demon LV15, you got 137 experience points. You killed. During the killing, a rare blue light reappeared. Zheng Mu immediately saw the information about the drop things from the barrage. Slime Backpack Without any hesitation, Zheng Mu immediately let Optimus Prime cover himself, and after Agility jumped down to pick up the blue light ball, he quickly returned to Optimus Prime's back. Slime Backpack, LV-10, Blue Elite Level Special Equipment It contains a storage space of 100 cubic meters, and cannot store living things. Storage Gear Zheng Mu looked at the bright colors of the place, and he hadn't picked up these things for a long time. 
the biggest reason was that he didn't have any storage equipment. Grandma, the whole world has become like an online game world, God, can't you integrate the function of the player's backpack? After complaining, Zheng Mu looked at the trophies that had been spread all over the floor. I secretly said in my heart. Sent. Chapter, 10. White common material, the wolf's fangs and hair of the bone-faced wolf. The cat demon's claws, poison sack, and hair. And the remaining liquid of the tumor slime. Although these are just the most common things, Zheng Mu will not abandon them. Although the items are common grade, the price on the market is basically a few hundred yuan apiece. Those living professionals need a lot of these items. As a rough estimate, just these white common level monster materials alone can earn at least 30 W. Not to mention, there are more than a dozen pieces of green quality weapons and equipment. The types of weapons are too complicated, and there is no possibility of synthesis, so they can only be kept and brought back to sell for money. He he he, this storage backpack came too timely. The internal space is equivalent to an oversized container. Both hands kept pulling the trigger, making Optimus Prime stop and go to clean the area here. Time flies. Finally, after two or three days, the number of monsters was still quite large. But it lacked the crazy feeling of being surrounded by zombies before. During this time, Zheng Mu finally upgraded several of his skills. Golden Hand LV3, it can transform monster materials, or materials and other items that do not exceed the purple rare level into mechanical components with similar properties. Cooling Time, 3H. Computing Power Occupied, 50. Battle Analysis LV3, you can calculate the opponent's attack path one second before the enemy target attacks in advance, no cooldown time. Computing Power Occupied, 10. Fire Reset LV3, reset the ammunition volume of consumable weapons of all mechanical creations under your command, cooling time, 3H. Computing Power Occupied, 30. Computing Power Enhancement LV2, to a certain extent, reduce the computing power value consumed by skill learning, currently reduced by 25%. Computing Power Occupied, 50. It turns out that upgrading skills is the big part of experience consumption. After several days of killing, Zheng Mu himself was exhausted. During this period, Optimus Prime temporarily withdrew from the poisonous ruins, slept in a car for a few hours, and then started to spawn monsters frantically again. However, looking at his face that has changed greatly, all the efforts are worthwhile. Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, Class A Mechanic. Level, LV1005W. HP, 100100. MP, 100100. Computing power, 190240. Strength, 24. Agility, 23. Spiritual power, 26. Constitution, 25. Skills, Combat Analysis LV3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV3, Firepower Reset LV3, Ordnance Transformation LV3, Computing Power Enhancement LV2. Mechanical Creation, Transformers Optimus Prime. Although the attributes are not outstanding among other professionals. However, as a mechanic, Zheng Mu's own attributes have very limited effects. And on Zheng Mu's side, he is waiting happily for the time when he has accumulated enough experience points to upgrade the last skill that is not at full level to full level. Optimus Prime under the seat suddenly sent a warning. Master please be careful, the boss of the monster is out. As soon as the words fell, Zheng Mu immediately saw that in the thick fog, a cloud of green liquid was attacking him. Optimus Prime's reaction speed was very fast, and the cannon in his hand was fired immediately. With a bang, the attack was instantly shattered. However, the three figures also appeared from the thick fog. Compared with the previous monsters, the three monsters were vicious cat monsters, bone-faced wolves, and tumor slimes that played several times. The three not only reached the level of LV-19, but they were obviously much smarter than the monsters that Zheng Mu and the others had killed during this time. At this moment, after seeing the terrifying Optimus Prime, Zheng Mu was evident from the faces of the three monsters. I saw a brief moment of astonishment. 
monster bosses in any area must have fought against professionals, and even professionals who died in their hands are not rare. However, like Xing Mu, he came up with such a great helper as Optimus Prime. It's really the only one. However, Xing Mu looked ferociously when he saw the three guys appearing. Hee <laughs> hee, it's good that everyone is here. I was worried that the mission time for the week would be up soon, and now I finally feel at ease. With that said, the skill firepower reset, was cast immediately. The cannon that Optimus Prime had just emptied was filled with 20 rounds in an instant. Optimus Prime, let our guests, see our enthusiasm. The next moment, the cannon in Optimus Prime's hand was fully fired. One after another, the shells accurately hit the three musketeers who had just run out of the poisonous ruins. In the rumbling explosion, the screams of the leader of the bone-faced wolf, the leader of the cat demon, and the tumor slime immediately stood up. In the billowing black smoke, the huge and toughest bone-faced wolf leader rushed out with his body scorched black and dripping with blood. Roaring, they attacked Xing Mu. Next moment. There was a snort. The scorching hot melting knife cut off his head instantly with lightning speed. You killed the bone-faced wolf leader LV-19, get 55 experience points, blue material bone-faced wolf leader's body. Without waiting for Zheng Mu to be happy, amidst the roar of the cannon, the leader of the vicious cat demon let out a mournful cry, which turned into Zheng Mu's experience points. Immediately afterwards, Tumor Slime followed closely behind. You killed the leader of the vicious cat demon LV-19, you got 489 experience points, the blue material the brain of the vicious cat demon. You killed the leader of the tumor slime LV-19, you got 561 experience points, blue material slime poison core. Although the three bosses did not reveal any powerful equipment, the equipment Shang Mu pictured was not such a thing. Accompanied by Optimus Prime, several surrounding monsters were killed. The expected system beep finally sounded again. Clearing mission Venomous Ruins completed. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Blue Elite Blueprint. Chapter, 11. Clearing Mission Venomous Ruins completed. Congratulations to the host, you got. Blue Elite Blueprint Liquor. Blue Elite Blueprint Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-800. Zheng Mu held his breath at this moment. After a long while, under the unexplained gaze in front of him, a suppressed roar erupted. Fuck. The appearance of the two blueprints instantly filled Jing Mu's mind with a lot of knowledge about mechanical creations, just like the Transformers Optimus Prime blueprints rewarded by the system before. Let Jing Mu at this moment have a terrifying knowledge reserve. However, this is not the reason why Jing Mu lost his composure. Exactly, these two types of blueprints rewarded by the system right now can really relieve his urgent needs. One is a liquor from the previous life of Resident Evil, and the other is a classic character in the Terminator. The former is like a mechanical creation made by the system, while the latter is a real robot. The panel was called up immediately, and the next moment, two lists of materials needed for the manufacture of drawings appeared in front of Zheng Mu. Blue Elite Liquor Manufacturing Needs Blue High Carbon Steel Metal Skeleton 1, Beast Fighting Core Motherboard 1, Beast Venom Metal Generator 1, Metal Filled Muscle Body 10, Body Internal Circulation System 1. Blue Elite Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-800. Manufacturing Needs, Blue High Carbon Steel Humanoid Metal Skeleton 1, Artificial Intelligence Carrying Core 1, Bionic Human Muscle Tissue 1, Body Internal Circulation System 1. Ordinary people must be stunned when they see these things. However, Cheng Mu, who has already adapted to his current status as a mechanic, quickly figured out the source of these materials. There is no doubt that this is the time for the mechanic's golden touch, skills to be displayed. The golden hand can convert similar types of materials into mechanical organs and tissues with similar functions. And just so right now, Cheng Mu really has enough materials to make the mechanical liquor first. Ask Optimus Prime to pick up the blue elite materials dropped by the three bosses. Looking at the body of the bone-faced wolf leader that was more than three meters long and still exuding a strong smell of blood, Zheng Mu covered his nose and used a golden hand without hesitation. In the next moment, the blue elite material, 
which was originally made of flesh and blood, transformed into a cool mechanical structure beast skeleton structure in a flash of light. The cold metallic luster exudes bursts of bright silver light. It is Blue's elite high carbon steel metal skeleton, a major material in the liquor's drawings. Then, another three hours of cooling time passed. Repeating the old trick, one after another, the venomous cat demon brain was transformed into a beast fighting core motherboard. Transformed the slime poison core into a beast venom metal generator. From a pile of green quality bone faced wolf and cat demon materials, some complete organs were selected and transformed into metal filler flesh and body internal circulation system. Most of the day has passed. The night has come again, however, in the poisonous ruins at this moment, there is a dead silence, not even a single monster can be seen. Manufacture. Following Zheng Mu's order. In the next moment, just like how Optimus Prime was synthesized back then, there was a burst of light mixed in, and the whole body was pitch black and metallic, with ferocious sharp claws and fangs, and a long serrated tongue that was flexible and full of sharp cold light. Name, Liquor. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level, Blue Elite. Durability, 800800. Attack Power, 160 to 480. Defense Power, 760. Skill 1, Hidden Breath Attack, Moves Secretly and Quickly, is more threatening in the dark night, no cooldown time. Skill 2, Tearing, Using Sharp Claws and a Long Tongue to Attack, the damage is huge, there is a chance that the target will enter a state of blood loss, no cooldown time. Skill 3, Very Poisonous, the metal used to make the liquor contains highly poisonous, direct hits will cause the target to enter a poison state. Skill 4, Scavenger, which can repair the damaged body by devouring flesh and blood for internal circulation. Skill 5, Beast Instinct, the liquor will have super learning ability and adaptability on the battlefield, can cope with battles of various intensities, and make the most reasonable judgment. Burst. Zheng Mu stepped forward excitedly and couldn't help stroking the liquor's metal body with his hands. This attribute can almost be said to be the best in the Blue Elite class. At least, from Zheng Mu's point of view, it's not a problem for liquor to deal with the three bosses just now. Ha <laughs> ha you really deserve to be an A-level mechanic. If it weren't for the fact that the blueprint of the Heavenly Tao appraisal is too harsh, it would be no problem to say that this profession is an S-level. Zheng Mu tidied up the battlefield excitedly, got into Optimus Prime's cab, and set off for the next destination. And on the roof of Optimus Prime's car, the liquor is firmly grasping it. He already felt the abnormality of the profession of a mechanic. Mechanics without mechanical creations, all professions are fathers. However, with the mechanics of mechanical creations, all occupations are scum. Take Sheng Mu for example at this moment, he doesn't have any offensive skills, and each skill has such a long cooldown time. However, the liquor, a terrifying guy, has no restrictions on MP and skill cooling time. And also has the ability to self-recover body damage. It is simply a killing machine with super battery life on the battlefield. After thinking about it, Zheng Mu's eyelids finally started to fight, and he fell asleep in the wilderness without the slightest worry. The materials for making T-800 have been calculated by Zheng Mu. Just in time for my next destination, Carrion Town, I can collect it. At the same time, what Zheng Mu didn't know was that a team with many of his acquaintances was also heading towards the corpse town. In the team, besides his best friend Kai Shinkuan, there was another character who made him feel overwhelmed for a while. Chapter, 12 In a team of 20 or 30 people In addition to a dozen newcomers from Yuntong Middle School this year, a dozen or so professionals with good breath and reasonable collocation were walking, stopping from time to time. Let the newcomers in the team fight with the simple monsters around. While upgrading, become proficient in the characteristics and fighting styles of your profession. Send it, send it all to me. Kai Shinkuan, a B-level golden gun shooter, is definitely a brighter presence in the team. Not only the fighting power shown by the opponent at the moment, but the green excellent rifle with both hands, and the gold light effect brought by each shot, made the flamboyant Kai Shinkuan stand out. On the other side, two newcomers from Yuntong Middle School, under the guidance of the hired guards in the team, 
were wandering and fighting with a LV-5 ingot pig. Kai Shinku inside has already made a series of headshot attacks, killing two ingot pigs of the same level. Looking at the glittering Kai Shinkuan, everyone around looked envious. Except for one person. Leng Binyue, who is at the same level as Jing Mu and the others, is an A-level professional like Jing Mu. Are you sure he said that he wants to apply for the Xingqing University? Humph, if that's the case, will he come to the leveling session that was organized with great difficulty today? I'm afraid I have found a corner and hung the southeast branch myself. If someone said that about his good brother, Kai Shinkuan would definitely raise his hand and give him a headshot. But if this person is Leng Binyue, let alone say a few words, even if the other party spit Jing Mu's saliva in front of his face, Kai Shinkuan would not dare to intervene in the affairs between the two of them. Facing the other party's disdainful words, he could only scratch his head in embarrassment. Well, he has a lot of ideas about poker. He has never been a person who would give up since he was a child. Although I can't get in touch with him, he will never do such a stupid thing. Leng Binyue squinted at the cowardly Kai Shinkuan. A slender short knife in his hand slashed at the monster rushing in front of him. Cold cut. Slash with the wind. With two moves in a row, the three ingot-headed pigs were directly frozen into ice sculptures on the spot, and at the same time they were chopped into ice slag by a burst of knives. In a burst of golden light, Leng Binyue's aura immediately became stronger. But it has been upgraded. In the team, Lu Lei, the strong captain who was in charge of the protection work, immediately looked over. I secretly said in my heart. It is worthy of being an A-level professional cold wind swordsman. Skill control can be weakened, and there is also a powerful offensive skill. With multiple layers of superposition, as long as you don't fall halfway, you will definitely be a strong one in the future. Thinking of this, Lu Lei inexplicably thought of another A-level professional from Yuntong Middle School, the mechanic Xing Mu. This is a pity. Just changing to any other A-level occupation is better than the current mechanic. At that time, there will be two A-level professionals in Yuntong City every year. In the future, they will be able to win a good name in the big battles for the major cities of the Dragon Kingdom. Bring more benefits to the city. Shaking his head slightly, he put these complicated thoughts behind him. The current situation is already quite good. This year, many cities have not even a single A-level professional. I don't know how many times more pitiful than Yun Tongqing. Okay, everyone tighten up the team, hurry up now, we will be able to arrive at Carrion Town almost at dawn, and the monsters in Carrion Town during the day will be restricted to a certain extent, making it easier for us to move. Master Master, we are about to enter the range of our destination. Optimus Prime's voice came over the radio. Jing Mu slowly opened his sleepy eyes, and through the glass, he could see a large group of buildings hidden in the dark woods under the distant skyline. The night over there seems to be darker and more terrifying than the surrounding area. It's like a giant beast with its mouth wide open, waiting for its prey to enter it, crawling there. Carrion Town, the risk factor is not very good compared with the poisonous ruins. But the horror factor is definitely to beat the poisonous ruins. Compared with the cat demon and slime in the poisonous ruins, the monster image here is definitely more terrifying than the other. Zombies, ghouls, poisonous insects, spirits, and even low-level ghosts. If it weren't for the fact that the two generals under Jing Mu's command were cold mechanical bodies that were not affected by the mind, he wouldn't dare to classify them in the planned monster spawning area here. As Optimus Prime got closer and closer to Carrion Town, Jing Mu, apart from feeling that the air had become colder, saw wandering figures on the dark road. Roar. A ferocious roar echoed when the sound of Optimus Prime's car came. The next moment, Jing Mu saw several disgusting zombies rushing towards the front of the car. Name, Corpse Poison Variant. Race, Ghost. Level, LV-15, LV-19. Skills, Painless LV-2, Hardness LV-2, Poisonous LV-2, Bloodthirsty Pursuit LV-1. Well, these are not even zombies, they can only be regarded as human beings infected and diseased by corpse poison. Accompanied by a few collision sounds, how fierce the opponent was when he rushed over, and how decisive when he flew upside down. But. 
Ordinary people were hit by a high-speed Optimus Prime, and they died long ago and couldn't die anymore. Those corpse poison variants were twisted bodies. After rolling in the distance for a while, they were struggling to jump over here again. Sure enough, although it's not a zombie, it has all the characteristics of being painless, hard, and not dying. Zheng Mu murmured, the next moment, the liquor who had been motionless on the roof of the car suddenly disappeared into the night. Accompanied by several faint slashing sounds, it came into the ears. On Zheng Mu's panel, there were a few extra barrages. You killed the corpse poison mutant LV-16, got 141 experience points, green material patient brain. You killed the corpse poison variant LV-16, get 140 experience points. You killed the corpse poison mutant LV-15, and got 121 experience points. Amidst the sound of rushing, a long metal tongue reflecting a cold light penetrated into the cab, and gently placed a green light ball in Jing Mu's hand. Jing Mu put the things in his backpack with satisfaction, and looked at the dark forest in front of him. Sneaky murmured. Good boy, I will trouble you to work harder. Chapter, 13 In the monster area of this world, there will be monsters of different cultural types according to different countries and regions. For example, the corpse town where Zheng Mu is located at the moment is a standard Longwa ghost town. Whether it is the outermost low-level corpse poison mutants or the zombies that will exist in the inner core area, they are all dressed in the clothes of the Long Kingdom Whip Dynasty period. However, it is no longer necessary to do it yourself here. In the cab, seeing the lickers who dashed out again and chopped off the heads of several necrophilia mutants with their sharp claws, Zheng Mu just felt that he should not be too happy at the moment. Feeling the end of the three-hour cooldown of Golden Touch Hand, Zheng Mu immediately took out a colorful brain from the slime backpack. Enduring the discomfort, drive the skills. Green Excellent Grade Material Pathological Brain is being transformed mechanically. You have obtained the Green Excellent Grade Material Primary Infantry Combat Core. The original slimy thing disappeared, replaced by a chip module the size of a mobile phone. Primary Infantry Combat Core, Green Excellent Grade Material Work by Mechanic Xing Mu, which can be loaded in the body of a humanoid combat robot, allowing it to have the standard combat quality of an ordinary thermal weapon infantry. Zheng Mu looked at the chip in his hand, thoughtful. Since it's only green level materials, won't there be chips that are too smart? Zheng Mu muttered, already thinking about the usage of this chip. Putting it on the T-800 will downgrade the original blue level T-800, but it is still a good workforce. Not to mention anything else, anyway, no matter how low level this thing is made, there is no need to worry about taking up computing power. As long as it is equipped with enough thermal weapons, such an infantry combat robot may be nothing in the wilderness. But what about a hundred? How about a thousand? Zheng Mu has his own drawings, as long as there are enough materials, he can manufacture such mechanical creations indefinitely. Even. Sitting in the cab, Zheng Mu couldn't help thinking. Maybe one day, with these mechanical creations, I can build a city of mine in the wilderness. Thinking of this, Zheng Mu's whole body became excited. Optimus Prime, Liquor, give me more strength, our future mechanical city depends on you. Outside, the Liquor let out a growl, which was regarded as a response. As for Optimus Prime, he also picked up some speed. Soon, after killing 30 or 40 zombie mutants along the way, Zheng Mu was finally able to upgrade his last skill, which was not yet leveled, to the full level. Computing Power Enhancement LV3, to a certain extent, reduced the computing power value consumed by skill learning, currently reduced by 50%. Computing Power Occupied, 50. The learning of new skills directly reduces the consumption of computing power by half. This makes Zheng Mu can't wait to start his upgrade journey again. Upgrade the level, unlock more skills, create more mechanical creations, and aspire to the top of the world. And at this time, with Optimus Prime entering the core area of Carrion Town. A system voice sounded again. It is detected that the host has entered the center of the monster area corpse town, and the system releases a field clearing task. Please clear all the monsters in Carrion Town within a week. Reward, Purple Rare Mechanical Material 1. Zheng Mu frowned, this time there was no reward blueprint. 
However, purple rare material is also a good thing. At the same time, Optimus Prime finally stopped in front of an abandoned street. With the sound of deformation, Zheng Mu sat flexibly on Optimus Prime's shoulder. On the dark street in front of him, in the hazy moonlight, more than twenty figures have already roared and jumped. Name, Fifty Years Jumping Zombie. Race, Ghost. Level, LV-18, LV-25. Skills, Painless LV-2, Hard LV-3, Poisonous LV-2, Powerful LV-3, Corpse Roaring LV-2. Roar. Even though his vision was a bit dim, the strangely fluorescent fangs and red glowing glasses couldn't be more obvious. Watching the other party jumping and screaming. Before Zheng Mu took out the double guns in his waist. The next moment, a black light flashed. In an instant, Tiaoji, who was rushing to the front, was thrown to the ground in an instant. On the stiff body, the straight arm struggled and waved, but the powerful and huge body of the liquor firmly pressed the opponent to the ground. The sharp, sickle-like fangs bit down fiercely. Click. There are level 20 zombies, and it is not easy to deal with a level 10 rookie like Zheng Mu on weekdays. However, facing Zheng Mu, a freak who fakes the tiger's power, he directly fell into the wrong path. Roaring and waving its claws with corpse poison, sparks were drawn on the liquor's body, but the bite force of the liquor was followed by a sound like a chainsaw. Increase abruptly. There was another click. You have killed 50-year-old jumping zombies LV-20, get 422 experience points, blue material cursed evil zombie. Blue material. Without Ching Mu saying a word, the next moment he dealt with the zombie liquor, he rolled up the blue light ball on the ground with his tail, and threw it precisely into Ching Mu's hands. Then he rushed towards the next zombie. Ha ha ha. A good start, a good start. Zheng Mu happily put the things into his backpack. According to his observation, this cursed corpse, can be transformed into a high carbon steel humanoid metal skeleton. Blue Elite T-800, required materials 1. The ensuing battle was on track. There are quite a few monsters in Carrion Town, but they are far less terrifying than the poisonous ruins. The biggest reason why this place is more dangerous than the venomous ruins is that the average level of monsters here is much higher. However, to Zheng Mu, these were nothing at all. Optimus Prime's cannon jumped stiffly at the charging heads, and fired violently. There was a huge explosion. Even though these guys were as hard as iron, they were smashed into a pile of slag by this fierce attack. You have killed 50-year-old jumping zombies LV-22, and won 510 experience points. Sure enough, what kind of gods and ghosts, all the sources of fear are insufficient firepower. Chapter, 14. The sky is dim. In a small camp not far from Carrion Town, Kai Shinkuen and others finally completed a short rest. After a LV-30 priest and the team used the light of purification, everyone's fatigue was swept away. After a short journey, he finally saw the first monster belonging to Carrion Town. Be careful, this guy is a mutant of corpse poison. You should have mentioned it in the monster information class at school. Captain Lu Lei has a level of LV-39, and he is considered a well-known professional in Yuntong City. With the strength of their team on weekdays, it is naturally worthwhile for a place like Carrion Town. But now their main job is to upgrade the nanny. Lu Lei led everyone to hide behind a bush and spoke seriously. The corpse poison mutant is just the lowest level monster in the rotten town area, but don't underestimate him because of this. There are too many new professionals who have become rotten meat in their mouths. Kai Shinkuen and the others listened carefully. Even Leng Bingyue, who is also an A-level professional in the team like Xing Mu, is serious at the moment. The corpse poison variant is between level 15 and level 19. With our assistance, it is the most suitable monster for training you. It is fast, has high defense, and is not afraid of pain. It also has corpse poison on its body. It is definitely a monster that is difficult to deal with. For a while, follow the team formation skills I taught you, cooperate with each other, and fight steadily. After Lu Lei repeatedly confirmed that these people understood, they finally walked out of the bushes. The next moment, the corpse poison mutant, which smelled the smell of a living person, 
suddenly turned its head. Roar! The blue-purple blood vessels on the ferocious face are very clear, and one eyeball is still hanging on the face. When he opened his mouth and roared, even if it was more than ten meters away, everyone seemed to have smelled the strong stench at this moment. Quick! Restrict his movements! Lu Lei roared. The next moment, Ling Bingyue and the team took the lead. Whirlwind Strike! Before the corpse poison variant had time to charge, a cold wind suddenly rose from under its feet, and snowflakes danced in the cold wind. In the blink of an eye, a layer of ice crystals was solidified on the body of the mutant corpse poison. Behind him, Kai Shinkuen didn't dare to be careless. A large amount of MP was consumed, several skills were released one after another, and the trigger of the green excellent rifle was pulled repeatedly. Weakness Intuition Precise Locking Load shooting. A small combo full of confidence was released, and five bullets hit the skull of the corpse poison mutant directly in an instant. However, the next moment, the smile on Kai Shinkuen's face froze. Fuck. Didn't die. Lu Lei glared at him angrily. Don't you look at your level, a little trash of level 3 or 4, and want to kill a wave of corpse poison mutants of LV-16? Ignoring Kai Shinkuen, who was like a fool, Lu Lei loudly directed the rest of the new professionals to step forward and play their roles. While signaling to his teammates, pay attention to protect their safety. In this way, under the protection of seven or eight people taking turns, and a dozen advanced professionals. After a lot of effort, Kai Shinkuen and other talents finally got rid of the corpse poison mutant. Ha ha ha, I've leveled up. Damn, this high-level monster really has enough experience. Kai Shinkuen watched as he rose by half in an instant, directly upgrading his experience. The fatigue of the body was swept away in an instant. In the team, several other rookie professionals also gained a lot. Lang Bingyue's aura was also a bit stronger. But she didn't get carried away like Kai Shinkuen, said lightly. Based on our level, jumping ten levels to kill monsters, even if there is a captain and they share a part, the rest is quite considerable for us. It's just a pity for your good brother, don't you know where to wipe your tears now? Kai Shinkuen fell silent immediately. I couldn't help but start to feel worried about Jing Mu. With Jing Mu's own strength, he is still a weak profession like a mechanic. It is very difficult for one person to upgrade even if he is fighting monsters in the lowest level area. It's even more incomparable to have big bosses like them with upgrades. However, any new professional who wants to enter Xingqing University, in the promotion stage, who doesn't enjoy the treatment of such a big boss. Adapt to more advanced combat as quickly as possible, and become familiar with the skills and combat methods of your profession. Kai Shinkuen frowned, but Lu Lei didn't care about it. In his opinion, Jing Mu must have given up. Blue Star didn't mean that no other professionals were selected as mechanics, but without exception, all of them were completely reduced. Unable to bear the gap, there are not a few who choose to understand themselves. Okay, it's all because of your own talent that we can be your guides today and take you to the next level. This is your luck, but you must also remember. The help that Yun Tongcheng can give you is probably limited to this in the future. What the future will look like, you still need to work hard. On this road, you will see more and more eliminated people. Work hard to upgrade. Just when Lu Lei, as a senior, taught these newcomers the principles of life. Suddenly, an archer in the team walked quickly, with a serious expression on his face. Captain, come and take a look, it seems that something happened. Lu Lei frowned and followed the other party to a small hillside. Next moment. Fuck. Lu Lei, who has always been calm, couldn't help but swear when he saw the scene in front of him. Kai Shinkuen and others who followed also looked outside one after another. Team, Captain, are these zombies robbed of their mothers? Chapter, 15 If you look around, you can see that the original sparsely distributed around the outskirts of Carrion Town. Unconsciously, all kinds of wandering corpse poison mutants rush towards the interior of the corpse town as if smelling a strong bloody smell. Along the way, some corpse mutants accidentally tripped over dead branches and stones. It was also rolling and crawling towards the direction of Carrion Town as if afraid of taking a step too late. Captain, 
What happened to this corpse town? Hearing his teammates questions, Lu Lei frowned. To be honest, he and his team members have been to Rotten Corpse Town a lot, although they still dare not set foot in the most core places. But a situation like today's has never been encountered before. It's not just the mutant corpse poison, all the monsters in the corpse town are running towards the inside of the corpse town. It seems that something must have happened inside. Lu Lei's thoughts moved, as if he had thought of something, his pupils shrank slightly. At the same time, like Lu Lei and the others, there were not a few teams who came to Carrion Town to level up at dawn. All of these people also encountered such problems. Some thoughtful and courageous people thought of the inside of Carrion Town, and it is very likely that something good has appeared. Either it's a boss that can drop good things, or a secret realm has appeared. All of a sudden, there were quite a few people who were not afraid of death, and rushed towards the corpse town. And at the moment inside the corpse town. Zheng Mu stared blankly at the tomb shrouded in black mist in front of him. He never imagined that when he was standing on the shoulders of Optimus Prime, leading the liquor in Carrion Town, when he was frantically harvesting zombies one by one. Came here out of nowhere. Fuck, how can this tomb still appear in the center of the town? Looking at the dark entrance of the tomb, the dense light made Jing Mu, a top student, immediately think of the true identity of the tomb in front of him. Mystery. There are good and bad things dropped by monsters in this world itself. However, regardless of the drop rate and quality of the item itself, this world is different according to different monsters. Wilderness monsters such as rabbits and wild boars that are close to human cities and live in the wilderness have the lowest drop rate. Often killing thousands of monsters does not necessarily produce a single drop. Further up are the poisonous ruins, monsters and bosses in monster-inhabited areas like Corpse Town. Further up, it is the secret realm that Zheng Mu is currently in. The emergence of secret realms is rare and often very random. It is very likely that it suddenly appeared here one hour ago, and disappeared in the blink of an eye the next minute. But there is no doubt that good things will inevitably be produced in the secret realm. Click. You have killed 50-year-old jump zombie LV-21, get 450 experience points, blue material flesh and blood full of corpse poison. A reminder flashed across in front of him. Zheng Mu turned his head and saw that the liquor was currently holding down the head of a zombie, tearing desperately. He didn't even notice that the other party had already received the lunchbox. With a greeting, another blue light cluster fell into his hand. Zheng Mu immediately used golden hand. Next moment. Flesh and flesh full of corpse poison, has transformed into a complete set of bionic human muscle tissue. Counting the materials dropped from other zombies, the artificial intelligence equipped core, and the body internal circulation system, Zheng Mu has collected all the components that are enough to manufacture the T-800. Zheng Mu found that the surrounding zombies seemed to dare not approach this place, and they all surrounded the tomb with hideous faces. In this regard, Zheng Mu did not hesitate at all, and immediately used the system to manufacture the T-800. With a burst of light flow. The materials needed for manufacture are blended together. The light dissipated, and a humanoid robot with the appearance of a standard tough guy appeared in front of him. What surprised Zheng Mu the most was that the other party was not what he imagined, without weapons. While the ammunition belt is wrapped around his body, he also holds an exaggerated four-barreled shotgun in his arms. There are several uncommon-looking grenades around his waist. Name, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-800. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level, Blue Elite. Durability, 800800. Attack Power, 40 to 800. Defense Power, 700. Skill 1, Multi-Barreled Shotgun Fire, use a multi-barreled shotgun to attack the target and cause a lot of damage, the ammunition load is 200,200. Skill 2, High Voltage Grenade, accurately throws a high voltage grenade to attack the target, causing damage while also causing a strong shock and paralysis state, the ammunition load is 1010. Skill 3, Leader Core, which can be connected to mechanical creations not exceeding T-800 level, and can be used as a battlefield mobile team. 
The more mechanical creations are connected, the higher the combat effectiveness of all mechanical creations will be, and the maximum will not exceed three times. Skill 4, God of War, after the component mobile team, T-800 can share the perspective of all mechanical creations, and can be called by Mechanic Zheng Mu at any time. Skill 5, Vacant Core, T-800 has a good potential for further improvement, and it can be upgraded with more advanced materials. Zheng Mu looked at the strong man in front of him, and just from the opponent's skills, he had already thought of the opponent's future position under his command. It can be upgraded, and it can also conduct overall planning and command, and it also has blessings for team operations. Isn't this a proper mechanical general? Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, Class A Mechanic. Level, LV1108W. HP, 11001100. MP, 11001100. Computing Power, 190260. Strength, 26. Agility, 25. Spiritual Power, 28. Constitution, 27. Skills, Combat Analysis LV3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV3, Firepower Reset LV3, Ordnance Transformation LV3, Computing Power Enhancement LV3. Mechanical Creations, Transformers Optimus Prime, Liquor, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-800. Chapter, 16. It's been a busy night. Not only has he been promoted to a level, but he has also made the T-800 out. Zheng Mu couldn't help showing a happy look on his face. Then looking at these zombies and corpse mutants surrounded by him, Zheng Mu couldn't help showing an evil smile on his face. Carrion Town is defined as a dark creature area by Tian Dao, and the monsters here will be weakened to varying degrees every time the sun rises. And because of this, Zheng Mu could clearly feel the aura emanating from the monster in front of him, a little weaker. In addition, if I remember correctly, the defense of a dark creature in a state of shock will be greatly reduced. With this in mind, there is no need for Zheng Mu to order it himself. The next moment, the T-800, who looked like he was not talking too much, suddenly untied a few electric grenades from his waist. The Celestial Maiden generally throws flowers into places where the monsters are densest. Boom! Crack! A huge explosion, accompanied by crackling thunder and lightning, erupted from the center of the monster instantly. One after another thunder snakes wantonly connected to these monsters. In an instant, a mournful howl resounded throughout. Accompanied by bursts of teppanyaki-like sizzling sounds. An Optimus Prime under Zheng Mu's feet immediately raised the fully loaded cannon in his hand. Boom! You have killed 50 years of jumping zombies LV-20, get 390 experience points, green or 15 poison they pay. You have killed 50 years of jumping zombies LV-19, and got 372 experience points. You killed the corpse poison mutant LV-16, you got 110 experience points, green material corpse poison gallbladder. You killed the corpse poison mutant. Zheng Mu has only just reached level 11, and he is at least 5 or 6 levels away from the monsters around him. Although the experience points have decreased a lot compared to before. But put it on him alone, it is quite impressive. Just like that, dense explosions occupied Zheng Mu's sight at the same time. The experience points also seem to have been pumped with chicken blood, rising crazily. Around him, dead monsters exploded in white, green or blue light clusters. It was as if a river of stars was reflected on the ground. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-12. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-13. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-15. You have new skills to learn. Optimus Prime fired all the cannons. The 10 electric shock grenades on T-800 have also been used up. At this moment, while these monsters are still in electric state, the four-barreled shotgun in his hand is firing bullets. All the zombies he hit in the bullseye received boxed lunches on the spot without exception. When the 200 rounds of ammunition were all fired, there were no monsters around. With a click, he snapped his fingers. The skill firepower reset, activates. The next moment, 
Optimus Prime and T-800, which were already empty, were fully loaded with ammunition again. Zheng Mu looked at the secret tomb in front of him with a smile on his face. He he, I really want to thank you. If it weren't for you, these monsters would not have gathered here. It is really impossible for me to destroy them to such a large extent. However, even so, Zheng Mu didn't rush in just like that. Click on the skill tree. Two newly added skills have begun to shine. What surprised Jing Mu was that one of the skills happened to be in a huge branch of the skill tree, which means that after this skill, a new skill system will be opened. Mechanical Cell LV1, transform the body cells of a mechanic, transforming biological cells into mechanical life cells from scratch. Note, the mechanical cells still have all the genes of the host and have the ability to reproduce normally, but when the host encounters a fatal crisis, they will recombine on other mechanical creations through partial division. Computing Power Occupation, 40-50% discount for computing power enhancement. It turned out that when Zheng Mu saw this skill, he wanted to transform himself. The first reaction is to resist without hesitation. Although he is a mechanic, he has obtained terrifying fighting capital by virtue of mechanical creations. But this doesn't mean that he wants to be a cold iron lump. However, after carefully reading the description of the skills, Zheng Mu discovered that the so-called mechanical life is not an existence like Optimus Prime in his imagination. Instead, while still maintaining the vital signs and abilities of human beings, it is necessary to make changes to the essence of one's own life. It can be understood as after becoming a mechanical life form. He is still the human Zheng Mu, but with the ability to split. This ability made Zheng Mu think of the Orochi scientist in a certain anime in his previous life. And Zheng Mu looked at the mechanical cell, skill, which has not yet been lit up. Mechanical somatic cell transformation, life source cell transformation, is equivalent to transforming Zheng Mu's somatic cells and reproductive cells. As for the subsequent, subdivided mechanical transformation skills, it is even more terrifying. After all, there are at least 60 different tissues in the human body, more than 100 types of cell types, and more than 800 types of cell subtypes, which are subdivided and transformed according to each other. In the future, I want to completely complete the mechanical transformation and evolve into a more advanced existence of the source of life. Zheng Mu needs to light up at least a hundred skills. These skills, even if one skill is 10 points, add up to a terrifying number. You know, Zheng Mu has now reached level 15, and his computing power has only reached 340. After learning mechanical cell, the computing power usage has reached 230. Damn, it's no wonder that this mechanic is said to be weak, my mechanical creations don't need to occupy computing power, I feel that computing power is too weak. Zheng Mu complained and looked at another skill. Nanomagnetic field scanning LV1, after using it, mechanics and mechanical creations will completely ignore the proximity effects of stealth and stealth skills. Cooldown time, 1 hour. Computing power occupation, 20-50% discount for computing power enhancement. There was no need to hesitate at all, Zheng Mu chose to study directly. And this time, Zheng Mu finally turned his attention to the secret realm in front of him. Step forward directly. The next moment, he who had just walked two or three meters in front of the tomb was directly sucked in by a burst of suction, and the three mechanical creations behind him also disappeared instantly on the spot. Chapter, 17 A Burst of Dizziness Zheng Mu only felt a blur in front of his eyes. Then came to a huge underground palace. On the panel, a piece of information popped up. You have entered the difficult secret realm Millennium Red Coffin. Maximum number of participants, 4. Recommended level, LV30. Conditions for customs clearance, kill all monsters in the secret realm. Introduction, thousands of years ago, a princess of the Dragon Kingdom was ordered to marry a northern country. And the coffin of the princess who died was buried in the northern country the princess's resentment accumulated, and the blood stained the coffin of the phoenix. Where's Nama? Zheng Mu, who was still looking at the surrounding underground palace full of Dragon Kingdom style with great interest, saw the column of suggested levels on the panel. He couldn't control it directly, and a swear word came out. I have only fucking risen to LV15, which is still halfway from the recommended entry level. 
Only when I came in by myself did I tell him that it is suggested that the thirtieth level is coming in. At this moment, Zheng Mu seemed to have seen a polite but not so polite professional smile appearing in front of him. And told him respectfully. Sir, if you enter a high-level secret realm by mistake, we suggest that you be cautious about the entrance to the secret realm in your next life. Zheng Mu now has the desire to hit someone. I dare to rely on Optimus Prime subordinates to kill several times in the poisonous ruins and corpse town at will. However, LV-30 and LV-20 monsters are not at the same level. And as if feeling Zheng Mu's inner collapse at this moment, a message came again on the panel. It has been detected that your current level is LV-15, which is far below the recommended level of the secret realm. Your item drop rate in the secret realm, increased by 500%. This time, without waiting for Zheng Mu to react, in the dark underground palace in front of him, the heavy gate slowly opened towards both sides with a heavy roar. In the distance, a blood-red coffin was placed on a high platform, and behind it was a screen with flying blood phoenixes. And on the high platform, neat rows of ladies in white with their heads bowed, and soldiers in ancient armor were facing the coffin, kneeling on the ground. In the underground palace, there was an inexplicable babbling and shrill singing. However, looking at the scene full of classical horror in front of him, Zheng Mu snorted coldly. Jumped directly onto Optimus Prime's shoulder. According to his experience of playing so many horror games and watching so many horror movies in his previous life, these people kneeling on the ground would definitely turn their heads as soon as he entered. Startle yourself. To deal with the terrifying BGM that came from nowhere, Zheng Mu directly used his magic skills. Puff Chi Ku times, Poker times, Poo Poo. A mouthful of rotten bebox came out of his mouth. Under the unknown gaze of Optimus Prime and other three mechanical creatures, Zheng Mu waved his hand. Immediately, Optimus Prime took a step forward and walked towards the palace. In the sound of rumbling footsteps. Just when Optimus Prime stepped into the gate of the palace, the next moment. Kacha Kacha. Looking at these female ghosts and zombies kneeling on the ground, Zheng Mu turned his head 180 degrees and let out a disdainful snort. The kiss of two wolves in his hand has already raised the muzzle of his gun. Bad review for special effects. Bang bang bang. Intensive and continuous gunshots, after Zheng Mu cast Battle Analysis LV-3, a one-second advance advance, so that each of his bullets can accurately hit the head of each target. Name, Ancient Wraith. Race, Ghost. Level, LV-22, LV-27. Skills, Ghost Step LV-1, Evil Spirit Scream LV-2, Spirit Absorption LV-1, Physical Immunity LV-1. The female ghost who was hit on the forehead, that is, the ancient wraith, was obviously taken aback. Then his body twisted, turning into a mournful white shadow flying about one meter in the air, rushing towards Zheng Mu. Zheng Mu frowned. It wasn't that he was frightened by the other party, it was the physical immune skill of the other party that made him feel a little disgusted. Although it is only a level one physical immunity, it will not completely ignore physical attacks. But saying less also cuts the damage by a quarter. Zheng Mu kept pulling the trigger in his hand, but his eyes turned to another monster at the scene, something that looked like ghost soldiers and ghost generals. Name, Corpse Soldier. Skills, Painless LV-3, Rotten Blade LV-2, Spirit Absorbing LV-1, Army Formation Carelessness LV-1. Boom! Compared to the ancient resentful spirit rushing towards him without any rules. The exactly 80 skeleton soldiers fully demonstrated what a soldier is. The moment they got up, they formed a neat team. There were 80 soldiers, but there were sword and shield soldiers, spearmen, and archer. Just when several mechanical creations under Xing Mu's command also launched an attack, several sharp arrows were already heading towards Xing Mu, piercing through the air. However, there is no need for Xing Mu to worry, the next moment, Optimus Prime just raised his arm, and easily helped him block the attack. Zheng Mu's complexion was solemn, and his lack of aggressiveness reappeared in him once again. The purple rare level kiss of two wolves in his hand is not weak. However, without the blessing of gunner skills, he was facing monsters that were ten levels higher than himself and had certain physical immunity. At this moment, despite his continuous firepower, 
the threat he can cause is quite limited. Looking at the unmoving red coffin, there is definitely the big boss of this secret realm. However, Jin Mu couldn't care about anything else. Shouted sharply. Optimus Prime, T-800, fire at full power. Kill me. Chapter, 18. Got orders from Jin Mu. The T-800, which was still reserved, accurately threw the electric grenades one by one into the group of monsters in front of them. Among them, the skeleton soldiers who were neatly arranged in an army formation and advancing towards Xing Mu's side step by step received key care. Boom. Crack. Crack. This time, as the thunder exploded, the monsters wailed mournfully. Even without Xing Mu's order, Optimus Prime had already raised the cannon in his hand. In an instant, violent roars shook the entire underground palace, shaking crazily, and the rustling dust above the head kept shaking. You killed the skeleton soldier LV-22, you got 799 experience points, Purplel 15 Ying Fong Ring. You killed the ancient Wraith LV-24, you got 953 experience points, Purplel 15 Moon Hidden Boots. You killed the skeleton soldier LV-23, you got 810 experience points, the Purple Rare Material Cursed Skeleton. You killed the ancient Wraith LV-23, you got 814 experience points, Purplel 15 Demon Smasher. You killed the ancient Wraith LV-24. What is the Big Bang? Zheng Mu swears that this kind of thing that directly explodes purple rare level things is extremely rare in the circle of professionals. Even in the secret realm, the explosion rate is much higher than in the outside world. But it is absolutely impossible for people like Zheng Mu today. Zheng Mu immediately thought of the fivefold explosion rate blessing when he first entered the secret realm, and finally a smile appeared on his face. T-800 raised the four-barreled shotgun and charged into the group of monsters. It fired a burst at the monster that was blown upside down. Optimus Prime also decisively stuck out the melting knife in his arm, and towards the skeleton soldiers rushing in front of him, he slashed Huashan Mountain with all his strength. Only the liquor received Zheng Mu's order and turned into a small battlefield cleaning expert again. In the blink of an eye, several purple light clusters were brought to Zheng Mu. Zheng Mu ignored the surrounding situation and immediately checked the harvest this time. In Wind Ring, LV-15, purple rare level jewelry, increases the wearer's wind damage by 50%, and increases MP recovery speed by 30%. Moon Hidden Boots, LV-15, Purple Rare Equipment, increases the user's movement speed by 30%, and increases the duration of stealth skills by 50%. Note, this equipment requires the skill, stealth, to be equipped. Zheng Mu. Gone. Zheng Mu cursed angrily. Increase wind damage. I have a fart of wind damage. As for MP recovery speed. Just as Zheng Mu was stunned, a pale ancient resentful spirit suddenly rushed in front of him, his blue and purple face turned white and his eyes were bloodshot. Facing Zheng Mu, he suddenly opened his small mouth that smelled like corpses. Zheng Mu's pupils shrank, and the two wolf kisses in his hands had already raised the muzzle of the gun, but still couldn't keep up with the opponent's speed. Just when Zheng Mu thought that he was going to be kissed deeply by such a disgusting thing. There were messages coming from the panel, and there was a strange feeling that something was being pulled away from the body. You have suffered a skill attack spirit absorption, and your MP continues to decrease. You. Zheng Mu looked at the little Karlami, who was enjoying himself, floating in front of him, and the horror on his face instantly turned into a grin. Holding the other party's fate by the throat. A gun barrel has been stuffed into the opponent's throat. Can I drink without peanuts? The next moment, Zheng Mu directly pressed the ladder on Optimus Prime's shoulder, holding a double wolf's kiss in his hand, and the gunshots continued. Bursts of grey smoke crazily radiated from the body of the ancient wraith as Zheng Mu continued to attack. With a pistol, Zheng Mu shot it with the momentum of a Vulcan cannon. It's just a moment's work. The ancient resentful spirit, who was pressed tightly in front of him, let out a mournful howl and turned into a handful of white ashes. You killed the ancient Wraith LV-23, you got 814 experience points, the general skill book Ghost Walking. Looking at a light cluster emitting a faint gold light in front of him, Zheng Mu picked it up and turned it into a scroll. 
Ghost Step. Isn't this one of the skills of the ancient wraith society just now? Zheng Mu looked at the few ancient wraiths still in front of him, floating in mid-air, as if they were weightless. I said how to be physically immune, but it gives people a feeling of being completely insubstantial. So this is that ghost shadow step. Zheng Mu muttered, without the slightest hesitation, he used it directly. The next moment, a wave of information was passed into Zheng Mu's mind. Zheng Mu couldn't help but fluttered away from Optimus Prime's shoulder like a frightened bird. This feeling similar to flying at low altitude made Zheng Mu forget for a moment that he was still in a level LV-30 secret realm. Just as Zheng Mu was floating, the remaining ancient grudges also flew towards him one after another. Facing such a large number of opponents, Zheng Mu did not dare to be reckless. Without hesitation, he turned around and ran back. Seeing this scene, T-800 immediately threw out the only remaining electric shock grenade. The next moment, the thunder in the sky exploded, and several thunder snakes in midair instantly hit these ancient wraiths. Amidst the mournful wailing, a round of attacks from T-800 and Optimus Prime followed. The few remaining ancient wraiths finally turned into Zheng Mu's experience points. And, there are colorful trophies all over the place. At this time, Zheng Mu finally relaxed temporarily. He picked up the purple light cluster that he hadn't had time to look at just now. Smash your firebolt, LV-15, a purple rare weapon, which is said to be a weapon from Western Demon Slayers. It can cause a lot of irreversible damage to dark creatures by firing powerful mithril bullets. Note, this equipment requires a firearm proficient in professional use. Looking at the firecracker in his hand, the attribute that can cause special damage to dark creatures made Zheng Mu unable to move his eyes away. Without any hesitation, he directly took out his twin wolf kiss and used the skill ordinance transformation LV-3. Dissipated with a burst of light. Two strangely shaped long pistols, one gold and one silver, appeared directly in his hands. Holy Land Demon Wolf, LV-15, Purple Rare Weapon, Work of Mechanic Xing Mu, Unlimited Bullets, can switch to fire poison bullets and mithril bullets, causing a lot of damage to the target. Note, this equipment requires a gun proficient profession to use. Chapter, 19 While Xing Mu was admiring the new weapon in his hand. Suddenly, there was a sound of heavy objects moving on the high platform where there had been no movement. When Zheng Mu looked up. But there was only a bang. The red coffin lid on the high platform flew up suddenly. Accompanying him was a graceful woman in a red dress, Fengxia, who rose slowly. Different from the bright red wedding dress, the woman in front of me who is obviously the boss of the secret realm is wearing a dark red wedding dress with a phoenix embroidered on it. Not only is there no happiness and celebration at all, but it is full of evil. The hijab on his head swayed without wind, revealing a faintly overwhelmed country, but it was full of the grey and blue face that the dead should have. Intruder, I will punish you to death. The sharp voice echoed in the underground palace. The smile on Zheng Mu's face, after seeing the attributes of the other party, he couldn't smile anymore. Name, Princess Ruby. Race, Ghost. Level, LV-32. HP, 28W28W. MP, 19W19W. Power, 339. Agility, 542. Spiritual power, 607. Constitution, 493. Skills, Spirit Absorption LV-3, Curse LV-2, Phoenix Order LV-1. Blood Explosion Curse LV-2, Vampire Curse LV-1, Physical Immunity LV-2. Zheng Mu opened his mouth wide, and the attributes of Princess Hong Yu directly stunned him. Directly more than ten times of his own. What's even more frightening is that whether it's Optimus Prime or T-800 under his command, he has run out of ammunition. There is still at least an hour before the cooldown of his skill firepower reset, ends. During this period of time, how should I deal with the boss whose physical immunity level is higher than that of the ancient wraith? Well, your royal highness, you just woke up, do you want us to chat first? Stretch your body. Zheng Mu asked with a stiff smile. However, what responded to him was a sharp bloody sword. In the sound of piercing the air, 
Zheng Mu narrowly avoided this move by relying on battle analysis, S1 second advance perception. Before he could be happy, he looked up again and was shocked to find that Princess Ruby had already rushed in front of him. A slender finger poked towards his forehead. Looking at the red-purple nails that were close at hand, Zheng Mu believed that this move would not be pleasant. Next moment. Boom. The imaginary penetration did not appear, but directly flew Zheng Mu out. Looking at Zheng Mu who smashed against the wall, grinning, but stood up quickly, Princess Ruby, the boss, also appeared momentarily confused. He stared blankly at his fingers, and then at Zheng Mu who had raised the muzzle of his gun to her. I have never been beaten by a woman in my life. Watch me shoot you in the face. The sound of gunshots, under Zheng Mu's precise shooting, did not give Princess Hong Yu a chance to rush forward. As soon as a mithril bullet hit the opponent, a black hole immediately appeared on the red wedding dress on the latter's body. Sizzling black smoke, amidst Princess Hong Yu's screams, emanated from the latter's body. Fuck, I can win. Seeing this, Zheng Mu directly stuffed his thoughts of pity and pity into his crotch. The index fingers of both hands turned into afterimages for a short time, tilting the bullet crazily. All of a sudden, Zheng Mu, a rookie professional who is only LV-15, started to output firepower against the full LV-32 secret boss. Zheng Mu looked at the opponent's gradually decreasing health bar. Although the speed of the descent is like a turtle's speed, Zheng Mu is not afraid. As a mechanic, he doesn't need to consider the consumption of MP. With three mechanical creations acting as blood banks, he doesn't have to worry about being instantly killed by the opponent. In addition, the weapon in the hand is also unlimited bullets without consumption. Immediately, when Zheng Mu looked at the screaming Princess Hong Yu, his eyes were full of fire. Crackling gunshots continued. It was not enough for Zheng Mu to fight alone, so he immediately ordered Optimus Prime and the others to join in the siege and interception. Although physical immunity level 2 is enough to reduce half of the physical damage, the other half can also grind the opponent to death. Seeing that Princess Hong Yu's blood is gradually bottoming out, Zheng Mu became more and more excited. However, this is a difficult secret realm after all, and usually four people of LV-30 enter in a team, and they may not be able to escape unscathed. Just when Zheng Mu saw that the victory was about to be grasped by him. Sudden mutation. I saw Princess Ruby flying around in the underground palace after being beaten by him, and there was something like a token floating out of her arms. In a burst of blood-red light, Zheng Mu vaguely heard a phoenix cry. There were bursts of clicking sounds coming from behind, and Zheng Mu was stunned by the scene in front of him as soon as he turned his head. The ancient resentful spirits and skeleton soldiers who had been dismembered by them were miraculously resurrected. Seeing Chi Chi turn his head to look at these monsters at himself. Zheng Mu turned her head stiffly and looked at Princess Ruby who was covered with black holes on Feng Guanxia's cape at this moment. Well, I said I was joking just now, do you believe it? In a minute. Fuck. Ah. Fuck. There is a kind of intermission for an hour, ah. I am going to die. Bang bang bang. The embarrassed Princess Hong Yu looked at Zheng Mu who was overwhelmed by her men, and a look of pride flashed in her blood-red eyes under the hijab. Then he ignored Zheng Mu and walked straight towards the coffin. Lie back down again. Five minutes later, after being crippled by Optimus Prime, it was finally Zheng Mu who was snatched from among these monsters. Before he had time to clamor for a counterattack, he was stunned by the slim and completely new Princess Hong Yu who came out of the coffin again. No, the two of us, who is the coward? Chapter, 20 Ah, uh, stop chasing, is it interesting? There is a kind of heads up. Run, run. In the underground palace, the battle lasted only ten minutes, but a shocking reversal took place. I saw that in the huge underground palace, Zheng Mu used ghost step, like a frightened bird, being chased and killed by a large number of monsters. Behind them, three subordinates, including Optimus Prime and T-800, tried their best to contain these monsters. But there are still dozens of guys chasing Zheng Mu and attacking frantically. From time to time, a few sharp arrows flew past him, scratching his scalp. Zheng Mu was so frightened that he yelled again. But this kind of behavior, on the contrary, 
made the boss princess Hong Yu standing on the high platform interested in playing with him. He was not in a hurry to join the battle, and just looked at Cheng Mu with interest, being chased and running around. He was hit by an attack from time to time, flew out and hit the wall, grinning. Seeing this scene, the corner of Princess Ruby's mouth curled up in a flirtatious arc. It seems that he is quite satisfied with Cheng Mu's embarrassment at the moment. It's just that she can't understand it. Cheng Mu is obviously a weak chicken. But no matter whether he attacked the opponent by himself just now, or the attack caused by these subordinates to Zheng Mu at this moment, they did not cause him the slightest harm. At most, the clothes on Zheng Mu's body were already in pieces. It has become a standard beggar's clothing. However, these are small things, just waking up from a deep sleep, it's good to have Zheng Mu, a little mouse, to cheer up. However, at this moment, Princess Hong Yu didn't notice it at all. While Zheng Mu screamed in embarrassment as exaggeratedly as possible, a pair of eyes kept looking towards her. Seeing that she didn't intend to make a move, she immediately relaxed a little. Soon, finally in a period of torment, the cooldown time of Zheng Mu's firepower reset LV3, skill expired. His eyes instantly hardened. Without hesitation, he cast his skills, and with a burst of clicks, the mechanical creation subordinates, who already had scars on their bodies, recovered their firepower one after another. The next moment, no need for Zheng Mu's order. The dense firepower poured down on Princess Hong Yu who was watching the play. The opponent's skill called Feng Ling, can directly bring these monsters in the underground palace back to life. And it's the kind of resurrection that won't have any rewards after killing it again. There is no need for Zheng Mu to spend time with the other party here. Kacha Kacha. Boom boom boom. The shock grenade hit the opponent's body and surroundings concentratedly, without giving Princess Hong Yu the slightest chance to dodge. When the opponent was caught off guard, he was overwhelmed by fierce artillery fire. Princess Hong Yu's mournful wail was extremely ear piercing. However, Zheng Mu only cared about the blood vessel at the center of the explosion. In just a moment of effort, it has already reached below 20% of the life and death line. Zheng Mu, who was extremely excited, seemed to have seen the scene after the other party exploded. However, sudden changes occurred. Damn untouchables! I want to kill you from the nine clans. The scarlet red light came from the smoke and dust in the center of the explosion, and under the gaze of Zheng Mu's expression changed drastically, it rushed directly into the open coffin. Fuck! Still here. The frightened Zheng Mu, ignoring the monsters rushing around him, immediately used ghost step and flew to the front of the coffin. Inside the coffin, Princess Ruby's eyes were tightly closed, her wedding dress was torn and a large piece of snow was exposed. The blood bar was like being injected with hormones, almost in the blink of an eye, it had already recovered to 80% of the level. Just when Zheng Mu was about to have a feast of double guns on this guy's head. One lotus arm was raised abruptly instantly strangled his neck. On the stunning face that turned all sentient beings upside down, veins popped out. The huge force at the throat, if it was another person, it would have already been directly crushed by the other party, and the dead could not die anymore. However, at the moment Zheng Mu blushed, but did not receive the slightest threat. Stinging electric sparks came from behind. Zheng Mu's expression changed wildly, a huge sense of suffocation had arrived, and he even dropped the gun in his hand to the ground. Princess Hong Yu looked at Optimus Prime and the others, who had been defending God to block and kill God, and Buddha to block and kill Buddha, suddenly seemed to have suffered a huge attack out of thin air, and began to tremble crazily on the spot. Arcs flickered on his body. Suddenly thought of something. Purple Red's gorgeous lips curled up in an arc, mocking Xing Mu with a sneer. It turns out that you and these puppets' lives are bound together. No wonder so many attacks before couldn't hurt you. You can be regarded as a hero, but unfortunately, it fell into the hands of Ben Gong. Then it's hard to keep you. As he spoke, Zheng Mu instantly felt the strength in his throat intensify. The gap of more than ten times of the whole body attribute points made it impossible for Zheng Mu to break free. His vision became increasingly dim, and Zheng Mu, who was struggling, suddenly felt as if his hands had touched something cold. A light flashed in his mind. 
Too late to think. Immediately choose to activate the skill. Gold Hand. Princess Hong Yu, who was looking at Jing Mu with a sneer, suddenly changed her expression as if she sensed something. When I lowered my head, I saw Jing Mu's hand, who at some point pressed it on the blood red coffin, bursts of golden light enveloped the blood red coffin in the blink of an eye. No. You pariah. What did you do? Amidst the angry roar, Zheng Mu was instantly thrown away by the opponent. However, a system beep sounded in his mind. Golden Hand LV3 used successfully. Purple Rare Material Thousand Year Blood Coffin is being transformed mechanically. You got the Purple Rare Grade Material. Chapter 21 Golden Hand LV3 used successfully. Purple Rare Material Thousand Year Blood Coffin is being transformed mechanically. You got the purple rare grade material. The sound of the system made Jing Mu resist the discomfort and looked in the direction of the high platform with difficulty. However, the boss princess Hong Yu, who was sitting in the blood coffin, was actually shrouded in that golden light, and together with the blood coffin beneath her, began to mechanically transform. What did you do to Bengong's blood coffin? You untouchable, I will never let you go. Die. You must die here. In the angry voice, Jing Mu was keenly aware of the obvious despair. There was no time for him to think about it, and the next moment, gold's light faded away. The blood coffin and Princess Ruby had disappeared together. Instead, it was a gold and red container, or the trailer of a truck. A line of information appeared in front of him. Machine's nest, purple rare grade material work of mechanic Jing Mu, with a huge built-in factory space, which can be used for the preservation, repair, and ammunition assembly of the mechanical body, with a built-in super-intelligent artificial system master control. Hiss. Zheng Mu gasped. However, the surprise clearly didn't stop there. When Zheng Mu fell to the ground, the ancient resentful spirits and skeleton soldiers swarmed over, and with the disappearance of Princess Ruby and the blood coffin, they all turned into pieces of dust on the spot. Dissipated in mid-air. On the panel, line after line of prompts appear. You killed the boss Ruby Princess LV32, and got 17 9W experience points. You have obtained the Red Brave Level Special Equipment Blood Phoenix Seal. You have obtained a random unique level skill book for this profession one. Ding! Because you have caused irreversible damage to the Secret Realm Thousand Year Blood Coffin, this Secret Realm will disappear forever. You have broken the curse of the world one, congratulations on obtaining the heavenly Tao point one, and activating the title heavenly Tao saints. You have upgraded, the current level is LV16. Due to the disappearance of the secret realm, you will be randomly teleported to the outermost safe area of the current monster area. He didn't even let Jing Mu figure out what happened to him. In a burst of light, Jing Mu only felt a blur in front of his eyes, his body twisted, and he disappeared into the secret realm. The central area of Carrion Town. In the end, Lu Lei and the others still couldn't resist the temptation brought by the secret realm. After thinking twice, they still entered the core area of Carrion Town. However, this time, Kai Shinkuan and the others were not brought along at all. And when they came to the central area and found the tomb at the entrance to the secret realm, there are already a lot of people around here. Captain, those people from the Black Wind Guild. Following the gazes of the team members, Lu Lei immediately saw a group of professionals that he was very familiar with, or in other words, the entire Yuntong city was very familiar with. Black Wind Guild The reason why these people are famous is not because of their great contributions, or because of who they are. Simply because of the methods of these people, very dirty. It's just that no one has been caught all the time, and this cancer in Yuntong city has been allowed to exist to this day. In addition to the familiar core members of the Black Wind Guild, Lu Lei also saw a few obviously newcomers. Hey, Captain Lu's news is quite well informed. We rushed here at the first time, but you still caught up with us. The unruly young man headed by the Black Wind Guild was dressed as an assassin, and his cold aura made people frown. Xiao Gu, even your Black Wind Guild has started to recruit newcomers. Lu Lei looked at those young faces. If Sheng Mu and Kai Shinkuan were here, they would definitely recognize someone in the crowd. 
Sea Level Professional, Steel Knight, Charter Dragon. The president of the Black Wind Guild named Xiao Gu sneered and ignored Lu Lei's question. Pointing to the secret realm in front of him. Captain Lu, don't worry, although you and I are fast, but we were still taken first. Speaking of this, not only the professionals from the Black Wind Guild, but also the scattered individual professionals around them all looked thoughtfully at the dark entrance of the tomb. Someone got in ahead of them. Either the other party died inside, and then they could enter the secret realm. Or the other party returns with a rewarding experience. At that time, I am afraid that there will be a conflict today. It's just that they don't know what kind of strength the people in this secret realm have. If you pass the difficult secret realm, the rewards in it are at least purple rare. Xiao Gu exchanged his gaze with several guild members around him, and had already determined the next course of action. A piece of purple rare equipment, no matter what occupation it is used for. All of them can bring their Black Wind Guild to a higher level of strength. It is not impossible to even raise their guild scale to a higher level and get out of Yuntong City. However, the only troublesome thing now is that Lu Lei is probably not easy to deal with. Under the eyes of the other party, it is really difficult to kill and seize treasure. Just when Xiao Gu was thinking about how to deal with the current situation. Suddenly, there was a rumbling sound from the tomb in front of him. Someone is coming out. What's the situation? Have you cleared the customs? What answered them was a huge explosion, and the violent air wave directly sent everyone caught off guard to the ground. Getting up dizzily, when looking towards the direction of the secret realm. In addition to a big pit, there is no tomb anywhere. After Xiao Ku was momentarily confused, he became furious instantly. Where are people? Where's the secret realm? Amidst the angry voice, everyone at the scene looked around vigilantly, thinking that the sudden explosion just now was done by someone who had cleared the secret realm. Search for me. It's absolutely impossible for that guy to escape from the secret realm without any injuries. Search them all for me. However, at the time when Carrion Town became busier than ever because of the raging of the Black Wind Guild and the subsequent arrival of other guilds in Yuntong City. Return to the Wilderness Road in Yuntong City. A huge truck, towing a gold and red trailer, was driving fast. In the cab. Zheng Mu was looking at the things in his hand and gasped. Chapter, 22. Blood Phoenix Seal, Growth Type, Red Hero Level Special Equipment. It was originally a traditional jade seal from a certain country in the ancient Dragon Kingdom. After being infected by the power of an unknown curse, it became an evil treasure. It can be used on dead human target corpses. Decompose, randomly extract a skill from the opponent's body, and make it into a skill book. It cannot be detected after being equipped. Note, the cooldown time of the current level equipment, one month. Hiss. Zheng Mu stared blankly at the blood-red phoenix seal in his hand, even though he was a mature man, he couldn't help being shocked by the thing in his hand, speechless. It was able to randomly strip out a skill from the deceased. If this information is released, it will definitely lead to riots among professionals in the entire dragon country, and even professionals all over the world will be frightened by the effect of this thing. Let's imagine. Why are some A-level, S-level, and even SS-level occupations sought after by the world? It's not because of the opponent's own powerful skill tree system that has no friends. There are quite a few skills among them, all of which have effects against the sky. And once these skills have the possibility of being stripped out, Jing Mu has already imagined it. I am afraid that if the information about this treasure is exposed now, I will die in the wilderness without knowing why before entering Yuntong City. I can't tell anyone about this from now on, damn it, you have to be careful when dreaming and sleeping. Although he complained about it, Zheng Mu immediately chose it as equipment. Watching the ladder turn into a ray of light and enter his body. On the panel, on the window representing the equipment column, the Blood Phoenix Seal is impressively listed. Fortunately, the opponent has the characteristic of not being detected after being equipped, otherwise, I am afraid that Zheng Mu really does not know how to deal with it. He was worried about putting this thing in the storage backpack. After that, it was the only level skill book for that profession. With the appearance of gold's light, a skill scroll appeared in Zheng Mu's hands. 
Module Seal Cutting LV1, Mechanics Only Level Skill, you can use this skill to apply the skill book you have on the body of the mechanical creation, so that the opponent has the ability to use this skill, cooldown time, 7 days. Computing Power Occupation, 150% discount for Computing Power Enhancement. Note, when this skill is used, it has a failure rate. The higher the seal carving level, the higher the failure rate. Looking at this skill, Zheng Mu couldn't help but stare blankly at the Blood Phoenix seal in the equipment column on the panel. It's like a match made in heaven. As for the up to 200 computing power occupied before the partial reduction, and the possibility of failure rate, none of them made Zheng Mu doubt the value of this skill. These days, although Zheng Mu relies on these mechanical creations under his command, he is killing all directions in the wilderness. But he still has a huge worry. Whether future mechanical creations can keep up with his growth rate. Now, with this modular seal carving, skill, all worries are gone. After the level has risen to LV16, Zheng Mu's computing power has become 250,360. 100 points of computing power is terrible, but fortunately, he can just bear it. Just after Zheng Mu had just learned this skill. Yuntong City is already in sight. The reappearance of Optimus Prime made the soldiers in charge of the city gate inspection immediately think of Zheng Mu a few days ago. Although there are so many people coming in and out here every day. But the appearance of Optimus Prime's truck is quite easy to remember. It seems that you have gained a lot this time. After returning Zheng Mu's ID to him, the soldier walked towards the trailer behind Optimus Prime. We need to check this kind of truck routinely. Zheng Mu has no intention of rejecting this. He got out of the car and opened the door of the cargo box at the back of the carriage for the other party. It was full of monster materials from the poisonous ruins, piled up together, and the colorful light flickered in and out. The soldiers in charge of checking the grade were shocked. Hiss, you, a rookie professional, can have such a big harvest. Zheng Mu shook his head hurriedly when he heard this. Brother, I'm just responsible for transporting these back. There are so many monsters, even if I stand there and let me chop them, I'm exhausted and I can't kill them all. The soldier nodded, and after checking that there was no problem, he let it go directly. In Yuntong City, driving on the familiar streets, Zheng Mu was extremely excited. The compartment at the back is naturally the machine nest, transformed from the thousand-year-old blood coffin. However, this thing can adjust the internal spatial structure according to Zheng Mu's requirements. When dealing with today's situation, Zheng Mu can directly transform its interior into a common container. As for when there are no outsiders. Stopping in a familiar dilapidated neighborhood, just as Optimus Prime stopped, Zheng Mu couldn't wait to jump out of the car and came to the back compartment. Walking into it, he closed the door from the inside with his backhand. The next moment, follow his thoughts. The whole person came to a huge space in an instant. The metal-colored square space is at least the size of four or five standard football fields, and huge robotic arms that Zheng Mu can't understand are hoisted here. As soon as Zheng Mu came in, he saw the liquor being repaired on the tool table, and the T-800 that had just completed the repair. Just when Zheng Mu was admiring everything here, thinking about creating a dense army of machines in the future to fill this place. A cold voice came from behind. What did you do to me? Zheng Mu was startled, and when he turned his head, he saw the familiar Princess Hong Yu, standing slim and graceful behind him. The face of the beautiful country, full of the majesty and noble temperament of the princess, is covered with frost at this moment. However, the opponent did not make any attack on Zheng Mu. A message flashed in my mind. Zheng Mu, who was still stunned, calmed down instantly. Not only that, but a relaxed smile appeared on his face. Didn't Her Royal Highness already know about it? Why ask this unnutritive question here? Although I have become the brain of this mechanical brood under my command, isn't Her Royal Highness also freed from the shackles of the secret realm? at least able to see what the outside world looks like. Princess Ruby gritted her silver teeth secretly, but the warning from the rules of heaven in her mind kept her from even thinking of hurting Xing Mu. However, with a thought, after sensing the magic of the human city in Yuntong City outside, Princess Hongyu couldn't help but fell silent. Indeed, 
although I have to accept all orders from Zheng Mu from now on, in a sense, I have gained a certain degree of freedom. Chapter 23 Jian Hongyu finally accepted her current situation. Zheng Mu also secretly heaved a sigh of relief, even though everything about the other party is now under his complete control. However, compared with a lifeless puppet, Zheng Mu is more interested in facing a life with joys, sorrows and sorrows. Well, intelligent life is also life. Uh, that, Princess Ruby is already in the past. Now that you have become my Zheng Mu's subordinate, you have started a brand new life. Seeing that the other party did not speak, Zheng Mu pondered for two seconds, his eyes lit up. From now on, you should change your name to Red Queen. As the intelligent brain of the machine nest, as the mechanical creations under my command become larger and larger in the future, you must be in charge of coordinating and managing them. What kind of princess, it's obviously not worthy of your status, it's more appropriate for the queen to come. It is said that Princess Hongyu, or rather, the eyes of the Red Queen looking at Jing Mu at this moment flickered for a short while. Just nodded quietly. It was agreed to the new name. Well, please tell me about the functions of the current machine nest. The Red Queen glanced at Jing Mu lightly, pondered for a moment, and then lightly parted her red lips. The current function of the mechanical nest is only at the primary stage. After all, the mechanical nest itself is just a huge and powerful mechanical component, not a separate mechanical body. In the maintenance of mechanical creations, at most one mechanical creation can be repaired at the same time. If there are more, it is necessary to increase the equipment for mechanical maintenance. In addition, the recovery of the ammunition depot can be automatically restored once a day. The amount of ammunition stored at one time is probably enough for the mechanical creations under your command that are capable of attacking firepower to use them for two days at full capacity. As for the preservation of mechanical creations, the Red Queen waved her hand, pointing to the huge empty factory space in front of her. There is only so much space here right now. If calculated according to the size of Optimus Prime, it can probably store no more than 200 units. Hearing this, the smile on Zheng Mu's face couldn't be suppressed at all. Not to mention anything else, just a problem with the firepower library is enough for him to assemble a powerful firepower attacking force. It is obviously unreasonable to have a fixed amount of ammunition reserves for one day, which is enough for the subordinates to fire at full strength for two days. At the very least, the amount of ammunition recovered every day must be consumed every day. Only by achieving a balanced state can the advantages of machine nest, be brought into full play. If it is based on the firepower ratio of the T-800, what size combat robot can the mechanic nest support at most? Including the current T-800, 120 combat robots of the same firepower type are the maximum that the machine nest can bear today. Hearing Hong Ho's instant answer, Zheng Mu nodded in satisfaction. The maximum value in Hong Ho's mouth refers to the 120 combat robots, which are fully fired and last for a day. Under normal circumstances, fighting to that extent is obviously very rare. Thinking of this, Zheng Mu has already figured out his next course of action in his mind. Come out from the machine nest. Zheng Mu directly carried the slime backpack and went to the largest monster material trading center in Yuntong City. The monster material trading center, as a subsidiary of the professional association, is an official organization controlled by the state. This is definitely the fastest place to sell and buy materials. Before coming here, Zheng Mu roughly estimated the value of these materials at hand. The total value basically fluctuates around 100 million dragon coins. Among them, various white and green level equipment accounted for the bulk, with a total value of more than 600 W dragon coins. As for those blue level and a few pieces of purple rare level equipment, Jing Mu didn't plan to take them out at this time even if he didn't need them yet. Not to mention that I will not be short of money for the time being. Only the latter's few purple rare level equipment appeared in the trading center in the small place of Yuntong City. It can cause an uproar. On the way to the trading center, Zheng Mu had already seen what was happening in the zombie town from the mobile phone forum. The secret realm appeared and disappeared, and everyone believed that the secret realm had been breached by those who entered it, and at this time, purple rare equipment was used. He is definitely hitting the muzzle of the gun. 
divided into several batches, after looking for different salesmen to sell. Just like Xing Mu imagined. Soon, more than 100 million dragon coins were credited into the bank card. When seeing the string of numbers, Xing Mu was a little dazed for a moment. 100 million dragon coins, if you had 100 million dragon coins at home, you wouldn't have to risk your life in the wilderness to get orders. Zheng Mu was inevitably a little sad. After all, the relationship of more than ten years, the cheap father in this world, really gave everything for his son. Shaking his head, this money is destined to not be able to keep much today. Go to the counter where you can buy monster materials. There are not a few people who are going through the procedures of purchasing materials here at the moment, but most of them are auxiliary occupations like mage, or life occupations like pharmacists. Hello, this is what I need to buy. How much do you have in stock? The teller looked at the tablet Jing Mu handed over, looked at the long list, and took a deep breath. Blue material body of a wolf leader with a bone face. Blue material the brain of the vicious cat demon. Blue material slime poison core. Blue material cursed evil corpse. Blue material flesh and blood full of corpse poison. Blue material zombie head. Little brother, um, sir, are you sure you want all these things? The value of these things added up is not cheap. Hearing what the teller said, Zheng Mu handed over the bank card directly. Tell me directly about your inventory, do you have a hundred sets? The teller was stunned on the spot by Zheng Mu's inhumane question. One, one hundred sets. You mean, all these blue materials need one hundred of each? Seeing Zheng Mu nodding, the teller took a deep look at Zheng Mu's appearance. It seemed to be compared with the children of some big families in the city in my mind, but in the end, none of them thought of Zheng Mu. Quickly lowered his head to check the inventory for Zheng Mu. Well, sir, some materials are enough for a hundred pieces, but some are not enough for the amount you want, you see. Take it all for me, just swipe the card. Chapter, 24 After a wave emptied all the materials he needed from the Monster Material Trading Center in Yuntong City. The 100 million dragon coins that have not been received for an hour just now have been directly consumed 9600 W. The current flow model of Zheng Mu is obviously the daily life of the life occupation and auxiliary occupation that have grown up. Professionals and life professions produce good finished products and make a lot of money at the same time. When purchasing a large amount of materials, it is also a process of large consumption. Yuntang Cheng is not big, but there are many professionals with consumption power like Qing Mu. At most, it is because of his youthful appearance, which is very special among such people. When Zheng Mu returned home from the trading center, no one noticed him. Golden Hands After ordering a sumptuous meal, Zheng Mu watched the cooldown period end, and immediately used it on a blue quality material he bought. The next moment, the skeleton structure needed to make a liquor was transformed. Hey, the cooling time of three hours, even if I set the alarm clock and wait, it takes half a day to create a mechanical creation, it's still too much trouble. Zheng Mu shook his head and sighed. I can only secretly hope that in the future, in the skill tree, there will be an enhanced version of skills like golden hands. Not to mention being able to convert higher grade materials, the cooling time is also shorter. Otherwise, it is always like this for three hours, three hours of waiting, how many years will it take me to form an imaginary mechanical army? Just as Zheng Mu was thinking, the cell phone rang suddenly. At first, he thought it was a takeaway, but when he picked it up, he realized that it was Kai Shinkun calling. Hello. Fuck. You finally answered the phone. Poker, where are you? Didn't you do anything stupid? Zheng Mu listened to Kai Shinkuan's impetuous but worried voice on the other end of the phone, and a warm current flowed through his heart. At home, what am I doing stupid? Waiting for takeaway. However, Kai Shinkuan's shout came from the other side of the phone, and the next moment, a familiar female voice came. You wait at home, we will find you in the past. With that said, he hung up the phone directly. Zheng Mu recognized the owner of that voice at once, and shook his head helplessly speechless. He couldn't help looking at the photo on the altar table, and sighed. Dad, Dad, I persuaded you back then, you just follow suit, now look, Aunt Qing has waited for you all her life, 
but she didn't get any fart, your son and I are also targeting that girl Lang Bingyuan nothing is right. Shaking his head, it seems that the emotional entanglement of the previous generation has finally fallen on their generation. Lang Bingyuan and the others were very fast, and when Zheng Mu just received a takeaway call, the two rushed over. With a dusty appearance, it seems that he came here just after returning from the wilderness. Lang Bingyue frowned slightly as she looked at Jing Mu, who was dressed in home clothes and looked relaxed, without the slightest sense of anxiety that they imagined. There was a sound of food coming out. Humph, let me just say it, this kind of guy still needs to worry. Eat well and sleep well, I'm afraid I've already forgotten the rhetoric of being admitted to Xingqing University. Lang Bingyue snorted coldly, pushed Jing Mu away and walked into Jing Mu's house. After seeing the photo on the altar, his face became even colder. It was this man who let his adoptive mother, who was in love with his brain, feed his youth to the dog. Thinking of this, Lang Bingyue's eyes on Zheng Mu became even colder. If that woman hadn't called me as soon as I came back and asked me to see you, I wouldn't have come to you. Zheng Mu curled his lips and Kai Xingkuan, who came in after changing his shoes, immediately whispered. Poker, don't listen to her nonsense. I've been on her team all the time. She hasn't received any calls at all. She's just worried about you. I see, 80% TSK TSK. Kai Xingkuan's voice was so low that only the two of them could hear it. Zheng Mu glanced at Ling Bingyue who sat down unceremoniously, opened the takeaway lunchbox, and began to feast on Ling Bingyue. He naturally knew the reason for the other party's attitude towards him. Without getting too entangled in this topic, Zheng Mu directly invited Kai Xingkuan to sit down and eat. Fuck, I just noticed, you are fine, why do you order so much all of a sudden? Huh, Xing Juke. No, poker, you can't do it. After this meal, you can spend a hundred thousand yuan at least. Kai Xingkuan had just picked up the bowls and chopsticks, and when he saw the familiar takeaway box, he was in a bad mood. Without hiding his worry, he looked at Jing Mu. You, can't it be a meal with a severed head? You're fucking in front of uncle, and you're going to prepare a meal for yourself. Are you a fucking man? Looking at Kai Xingkuan who stood up excitedly and roared at him, Jing Mu was both amused and happy. It's good to say that it's finally to let the other party calm down temporarily. He he, what is the death penalty? I am a person who wants to pass the entrance examination of Xingqing University. The death method of the death penalty is not my choice. As Zheng Mu said, from the corner of his eye, he noticed keenly that Leng Bingyue's hand holding the chopsticks visibly relaxed a little. Smiling secretly in his heart, sure enough, even if he has awakened and become a professional. Still can't change that arrogant character. Kai Xingkuan looked at the sumptuous delicacies on the table with a frown, and several of them were made of monster materials, which can only be handled by professionals in life. Then you are. Zheng Mu smiled lightly, and had no intention of continuing to hide. Clapped hands. The next moment, amidst the sound of the door opening, a strong man like an iron tower walked out of his room with a blank expression on his face. The heavy footsteps made Leng Bingyue's pupils shrink. Almost without thinking, an exploratory technique was thrown in the past. Name, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-800. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level, Blue Elite. Durability, 800800. Attack Power, 40 to 800. Defense Power, 700. With Xing Mu's deliberate permission, some information about the T-800 immediately appeared before Lang Bingyue's eyes. When I saw the bright words works of Mechanic Xing Mu. Even with the full level of expression management, she showed a clear expression of shock. You actually created a mechanical creation that can be recognized by the heavens? Chapter 25 Why does the mechanic obviously have an A-level rating recognized by Heavenly Dao? In the eyes of the world, it is not as good as the most common life professional. It is difficult for mechanical creations to be recognized by the Dao of Heaven. To create a combat partner that can be driven, at least half of the responsibility for this reality must be borne. However, at this moment, when the T-800, which was as strong as an iron tower, had an ammunition chain wrapped around its body, 
a grenade hanging around its waist, and an exaggerated four-barreled shotgun on its back, appeared in front of her. Leng Bingyue, who has been upgraded to level LV6, also clearly felt a strong sense of threat from the opponent. The attack can reach up to 800, and the defense also has the amount of 700. It is already equivalent to a monster attribute above level LV20. Even today's Ling Bingyue, as an A-level professional cold wind swordsman, with the blessing of skills and equipment, the maximum attack amount can only reach about 60. Even this has been praised and envied by seniors like Lu Lei. However, the mechanical creation created by Zheng Mu has the lowest attack power of 40. Suddenly, the worry about Zheng Mu's future that he didn't want to admit in his heart, at this moment, turned into anxiety about the gap between his future and the other party. Unlike Leng Bingyue's silence, Kai Shinkuan stepped forward excitedly and stroked T-800's body. Fuck, this is a mechanical creation. It seems to be no different from ordinary people, but this touch has an obvious metallic texture poker, when did you make these? Why didn't you take it out earlier, let us worry for nothing. Hearing Kai Shinkuan's we pulled herself in, Leng Bingyue frowned, but still didn't say anything to refute. Asked. Have you been working on this these days? Zheng Mu nodded, that's right. I'm going to level up in the wilderness tomorrow. Do you want to come together? We can take care of each other. I've heard about what happened in Corpse Town today. I'm afraid some of the professionals you lead are busy. Hearing that, before Leng Bingyue said anything, Kai Shinkuan nodded and agreed without hesitation. Seeing this, Zheng Mu didn't give Leng Bingyue a chance to refuse, so he made a final decision. Okay, then it's settled. Come to me tomorrow morning, and we will set off together. Zheng Mu is still in a hurry, but he has not forgotten that he still has a field clearing task on him. Two days have passed in a week to clean up the monsters in Corpse Town. And after knowing that Zheng Mu would not have any short sighted thoughts, Kai Shinkuan and the two didn't say anything more and after a feast at Jing Mu's place, they got up and left. The next day. When the two men in full gear appeared at Jing Mu's place again, they saw that he was about to drive away. Poker, you drive a guy this big to the wilderness? Are you sure? Kai Xingkuan was suspicious and wanted to persuade him, but he was interrupted by Jing Mu. Okay, stop talking nonsense, I'm not a fool, hurry up and get in the car. Behind him, Leng Bingyue took a deep look at Optimus Prime with cool spray paint, and threw a probing technique over. However, no information was obtained. Frowning slightly, he followed Kai Shinkuan and got into the cab, but he sat in the co-pilot seat. The gate of Yuntong City. Ha! Huh. I just came back yesterday, and I'm going out again today. Even if you want to make money, you must pay attention to safety. Hearing the inspecting soldier's words, Leng Bingyue, who was sitting by the side, looked at Zheng Mu and suddenly became puzzled. Did you go out yesterday? Zheng Mu smiled lightly, but did not answer. While skillfully driving Optimus Prime towards the direction of Carrion Town, his mind has already begun to fantasize and analyze the wonderful expressions of the two of them. The current him, even if he doesn't use Optimus Prime, the power under his command is enough for you to let him walk sideways in a place like Carrion Town. When Zheng Mu and the others arrived at the outskirts of Carrion Town, it was already noon. In the distance, Zheng Mu has already seen more than a dozen zombie mutants wandering slowly under the scorching sun. Leng Bingyue and Kai Xinkuan prepared to fight solemnly. However, after Zheng Mu jumped out of the car, he went directly to the place where the boxes were being pulled, walked into it, and soon moved out a set of tables, chairs and benches, and even set up a parasol. Leng Bingyue watched and then took out a cold beer and a meat grill. After Zheng Mu with a bunch of ingredients, his brows were furrowed. What are you going to do? A harmless smile appeared on Zheng Mu's face, and he spread his hands. It's okay, you are busy with your work, I just find something to do for myself, of course, when you get tired after a while, you can just take a rest. With that said, Zheng Mu sat down on the chair majestically, and picked up a bottle of cold beer. He made a gesture of please start your performance to the two of them. The sound of footsteps came from behind, Leng Bingyue looked back, but saw two T-800s had already jumped out of the carriage. Before she was shocked, there were actually two such mechanical creations under Zheng Mu's command. 
At some point, a crawling metal monster that appeared on the roof also jumped off. Lang Binyue immediately threw a probing technique. Name, Liquor. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xingmu. Level, Blue Elite. Durability, 800800. Attack Power, 160 to 480. Defense Power, 760. Another mechanical creation made by Zheng Mu. Now, even Ling Binyue, who had always been sarcastic to Zheng Mu, had to look at Zheng Mu in a different way. You actually succeeded in making two kinds of mechanical creations. How did you do it? For hundreds of years, mechanics have mentioned thousands of them, but no one has ever made any advanced mechanical creations. Even if there is, it's only a white common level existence, you. Zheng Mu looked at Lang Binyue who was talking too much with a funny face, but it was the old god who was sipping the cold beer. Student Lang Binyue, if you don't go, these mechanical creations under my command probably won't even leave a mouthful of soup for you. As soon as the words fell, there was a violent shotgun sound. When the two looked back, they saw a mutant corpse poison, whose head had been blown off by AT-800. Under the effect of the debuff of the scorching sun, it can be dealt with by the opponent with one blow. Kai Shinkuen saw this scene, and when he turned his head to look at Zheng Mu at this moment, his face suddenly became constipated. After holding back for a long time, he still uttered a sentence full of envy, jealousy and hatred. Aren't you going too far, are you coming to the wilderness for vacation? Chapter 26 Taking a Wilderness Vacation Zheng Mu looked at his fairly suitable wilderness at the moment. He was dressed in a decent combat uniform, military combat boots, and even prepared a pair of sunglasses for himself to prevent the sun from shining on his eyes. Of course, if one ignores the sizzling meat skewers in front of him at this moment, and the beer emitting bursts of ice mist. That all makes sense. For Zheng Mu's behavior, even Ling Binyue gritted his teeth secretly. However, seeing the three mechanical creations that had already massacred those corpse poison mutants, she had no choice but to rush up immediately. Wielding a long knife in his hand, he instantly froze a corpse poison variant and at the same time slashed at the opponent's neck. Crack! The ice shards shattered and flew, but it didn't kill the mutant corpse poison in one move as expected. Roar! Lang Binyue's expression changed wildly when he saw the corpse poison mutant that was roaring ferociously and coming towards her claws. Kai Shinkuen, who was behind him, hadn't responded yet to help. Seeing this also changed his expression greatly. However, just when Lang Binyue thought that he might be in danger today, a cold metal monster suddenly rushed in front of him. The horrifying corpse poison mutant, which was enough to threaten her life one on one, had already been rushed out by the liquor. All kinds of struggles, but they can only be dismembered in the blink of an eye in front of the liquor's sharp claws. You assisted in killing the corpse poison mutant LV-16, and got 103 experience points. The prompts that floated in front of the panel made cold sweat run down Lang Binyue's forehead. After glancing back at Kai Shinkuen who was ashamed, he couldn't help but look in Zheng Mu's direction, only to see the latter holding the can of cold beer at her from afar. Snort. The arrogant personality developed in her childhood made her grin coldly even though she was grateful to Zheng Mu for his help. A look of blaming Zheng Mu for meddling in his own business. Regarding this, Zheng Mu and Kai Shinkuen, who had already seen through everything, just laughed and said nothing. The next battle was much smoother. Kai Shinkuen is a long-range attacking class, combined with Leng Bingyue's close-up combat style that can control and kill, plus Cheng Mu's mechanical creations to protect from the side. In less than an hour, more than a dozen corpse poison mutants were killed. Zheng Mu watched the two of them come back panting slightly, and he silently put away the mechanical components transformed with the golden hand, in his hand. Poker, we both reached level 7, what level are you now? The few mechanical creations of yours have killed monsters a lot. All the experience points belong to you alone. You can at least upgrade two levels, right? Kai Shinkuen asked sourly. However, Zheng Mu looked at his experience tube, but shrugged helplessly. Unfortunately, upgrading still has a long way to go for me. On the side, Lang Binyue, who was drinking water, 
suddenly raised his brows, without the slightest hint of politeness, and threw a probing technique at Cheng Mu. However, nothing was seen. He he, student Lin Bingyue, have you heard a word? Zheng Mu looked at the other party with a half-smile, and had systematic protection. As long as he didn't want to, no one could detect his attribute information. A girl must not be curious about the opposite sex, otherwise, she will fall into danger in a short time. An unnatural blush appeared on Leng Bingyue's face for a short while, and there was obvious shame in his eyes. The hand holding the water glass is visibly exerting strength. He couldn't hide the look in the eyes of the swordsman. After a long while, he finally let out a cold snort, turned around and sat in the cab. Boring. Glancing at Kai Shinkuan, who was winking at the side, the two of them already knew it, and put Jing Mu's things into the cargo box behind with a smile without saying a word. The truck directly becomes a simple RV. In fact, if it wasn't for fear of scaring the two of them, they would have doubts about Optimus Prime's truck at the same time. Zheng Mu can directly transform the mechanical nest into a standard luxury RV cabin. Optimus Prime started again and rushed towards the interior of Carrion Town. Stop and go all the way. Zheng Mu didn't intend to fight himself, but when Ling Bingyue and the others didn't notice, he released a manufactured T-800. Let the other party independently search for monsters in the corpse town and collect them. Even if the monsters in the wild are killed, they will respawn after a week or so. Want to clear the field as quickly as possible without exposing Optimus Prime. Zheng Mu can only keep his skill cooldown time stuck. Make more T-800s and liquors. As night fell, the jumping zombies and ghouls in Rotten Town had obviously exceeded the level that Leng Bingyue and the others could handle. However, these are really nothing to Zheng Mu. With the ammunition support of Machine Nest, the shotgun and shock grenade in T-800's hands are not exhausted at all. Amid the rumbling explosions and muffled gunshots, these monsters rushed out just now. In the blink of an eye, it was blown to pieces. One step away from death. You assisted in killing 50 years jump zombie LV-19, and got 211 experience points. You assisted in killing the corpse poison mutant LV-18, and got 183 experience points. You assisted in killing the corpse poison mutant LV-22, and got 303 experience points. You. You have upgraded, the current level is LV-9. Leng Bingyue felt a burst of strengthening from her body, and looked at Jing Mu, who was sitting on the roof of the car without any scruples, and was admiring the starry sky. The stubbornness in her heart made her not want to bow to Jing Mu, an annoying guy. However, the feeling of being led away by a boss like this is really cool. They add up to no more than three people, and the experience points are distributed to everyone, which is quite considerable. Finally, after another wave of zombies was dealt with, Leng Bingyue finally walked towards Xing Mu. He gritted his teeth and asked. How many levels are you now? Chapter 27 Looking down at Leng Bingyue with his head up, his eyes full of curiosity. Zheng Mu smiled lightly. You guess. Leng Bingyue. Sure enough, no wonder I hated this guy since I was a child. The woman in the family who loves her brain cares about this guy more than she cares about her adopted daughter. Thanks to myself, I was worried that the woman would be sad if she knew about this guy's self-understanding. She cared so much about him, so she really should feed her kindness to the dogs. Zheng Mu didn't know about this deadly Tsundra, and he had already started to think about it in his heart. Looking at the depressed expression on the other party's face, the smile on his face grew stronger, and he took out a box of steaming and fragrant takeaway from the storage backpack. It's time for dinner, can we continue after dinner? In the carriage, looking at the eerie and decaying buildings of Carrion Town outside the window, he looked back at the table of delicacies in front of him. This absurd feeling left Leng Bingyue and Kai Shinkuan in a daze. It's not Big Brother let's eat hot pot here isn't it a bit disrespectful to those zombies? Kai Shinkuan said nonchalantly, even though he was born in a wealthy family, he seemed a little at a loss when faced with such a situation. They are now inside Carrion Town. Any monster that rushes out randomly is an existence above LV-15. There are not a few even those above LV-20. 
Zheng Mu looked at the two people who suddenly became stiff with amused expression, and pointed to the constant sound of gunshots outside. There are bodyguards guarding you outside. You can eat your food with peace of mind. Only when you are full can you continue killing monsters and leveling up. Don't you two want to go to Xingqing University? Of course I thought about it. Kai Xingkuan shouted immediately. However, then he realized something, and looked at Zheng Mu in surprise. Poker, what do you mean, you want to take us to St. Qin University? Zheng Mu raised his eyebrows and smiled, what? You don't want to go. How is that possible? That is the top professional university in the entire Dragon Kingdom. Those who came out from there are at least the existence of a city lord. Even now, half of the top ten guardian gods in my Dragon Kingdom are from the Holy Spirit. Tsinghua University, we. Seeing the excitement of Kai Xingkuan's spittle splashing, he talked about the greatness of Xingqin University in his heart. Leng Bingyue at the side spoke suddenly. I don't need you to get into Xingqin University. Zheng Mu gave this guy a sideways look. He was really handsome. Among the opposite sexes he had seen, perhaps only the Red Queen from Machine Nest, could compare with him. This is the character. Humph. Zheng Mu chuckled jokingly, and looked at Kai Xingkuan who was at the side. How many monsters did you kill this afternoon? The latter didn't think much, and answered directly. About twenty or so. Your mechanical creations are really fierce. Many of them couldn't control their strength, and they were shot to death directly. Zheng Mu looked at Ling Bingyue with a strange expression. Hee hee, but some guys who killed at least thirty zombies without making a sound, now they don't recognize anyone with their pants up. The mouth says no, but the body is so honest. Click. Kai Shinkuan was startled, feeling the chill coming from around him, he hurriedly lowered his head and began to adjust the ingredients for himself. Out of the corner of my eye, Len Binyue's face was covered with frost before, but now his face was turning blue and red. After all, she is a little girl who wants to lose face. She was so blatantly exposed by Zheng Mu that she was so angry that the chopsticks in her hand were broken. However, in the face of the irrefutable facts that he has done. Except for Lang Bingyue's embarrassment and indignation. But nothing can be refuted. Zheng Mu smiled and put a piece of freshly cooked mutton on the other party's plate. Smiling softly and playfully. Don't worry, little sister Bingyue. Aunt Qin takes such good care of me on weekdays, you pastor my big brother, I will definitely take good care of you, come on, eat more, be good. Kai Xinkuan. Kai Xinkuan lowered his head even deeper, and the expression on his face was wonderful. A hand under the table silently gave Zheng Mu a thumbs up. The only one who dares to flirt with Yuntong Middle School's Bingshan beauty like this is you, Zheng Xuaba. Kai Xinkuan didn't even know how he finished his meal. In short, after a meal, although everything is eaten. The full name does not have any sense of experience at all, Ling Bingyue beside her is staring at Jing Mu from beginning to end, and when chewing food, she seems to be gnashing her teeth so much. After eating and drinking enough, the two started the upgrade journey again. However, this time, Ling Bingyue looked particularly ferocious, as if he had been beaten with chicken blood. To catch a zombie, the skill is to greet the opponent like crazy. On the top of Optimus Prime's carriage, Zheng Mu lay on a recliner, sighed and shook his head upon seeing this. You're still too young, you only have this concentration, TSK TSK. While muttering to himself, the golden touching hand activated again. The next moment, enough materials to assemble a T-800 were converted again without any hesitation. Taking advantage of the fact that the two of them didn't pay attention, they synthesized directly. Go. Clean up all the monsters in Carrion Town for me. If you encounter something that cannot be solved, call your companions around for support. The next moment, a heavily armed T-800 with no doubt about its appearance as a human walked straight into the Dark Corpse Town. Blink disappeared from Zheng Mu's sight. Nights in Carrion Town are undeniably spooky. Ordinary people who come here to level up will choose to leave here before dark. The three of Zheng Mu are a different kind of existence. With the assistance of two fully fired T-800s and a roaming and killing liquor, the three completely regarded this place as a harvesting place for their own experience. 
However, at the edge of a corpse town not too far away from them, a small team was also fighting here. Xiao Ku's figure flickered a few times in the darkness, and the next moment, there was a deep blood hole in the back of his head that was jumping stiffly. Hurry up, everyone, that secret realm may appear again today, this time we must seize the opportunity. But at this moment, a faint gunshot attracted the vigilance of several people. Chapter 28 Name, Jing Mu Occupation, Class A Mechanic Level, LV-16016W HP, 16001600 MP, 16001600 Computing Power, 250360 Strength, 36 Agility, 35 Spiritual Power, 38 Constitution, 37 Skills, Combat Analysis LV3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV3, Firepower Reset LV3, Ordnance Transformation LV3, Computing Power Enhancement LV3, Mechanical Cell LV3, Nanomagnetic Field Scanning LV3, Module Seal Cutting LV1, Ghost Step LV3. Mechanical Creations, Transformers Optimus Prime, Liquor 3, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-805. Grandmas, it's really the only level of skill, LV1 needs 100-00 experience to upgrade to LV2. On the roof of the carriage, Zheng Mu looked at the information on his panel, and his teeth ached. Originally, he thought about upgrading his only level modular seal carving, but it turned out that only the upgrade of LV1, LV2 required 10W experience points, which made him directly discouraged. After a busy day, I only accumulated more than 30 zero, zero experience points. He can only settle for the next best thing and upgrade other skills that are not at the same level. Ghost Step LV3, common skill, can move quickly at a low altitude of no more than 3 meters, and produce no more than 3 phantoms, causing visual interference to the enemy. Nanomagnetic Field Scanning LV3, after using it, mechanics and mechanical creations will completely ignore the proximity effects of stealth and stealth skills. Cooldown Time, 1 minute. Computing Power Occupation, 20-50% discount for Computing Power Enhancement. Mechanical Cell LV3, transforming the body cells of a mechanic, transforming biological cells into mechanical life cells from scratch. Note, the mechanical cells still have all the genes of the host and have the ability to reproduce normally, but when the host encounters a fatal crisis, they will recombine on other mechanical creations through partial division. Computing Power Occupation 40-50% discount for computing power enhancement. The transformation of mechanical cells requires a large number of mechanical creations as fuel for combustion. It can be regarded as sacrificing part of the mechanical creation to strengthen one's own skills. And the mechanical cell, that has been upgraded to the third level, whether it is the decomposition of mechanical creations or the speed of fusion into itself, has reached the maximum level. You only need to light up the following branch skills in the future, and you can officially start upgrading your own life level. However, just when Jing Mu was worried that he didn't have enough experience points, he suddenly received a warning from a liquor that was distributed secretly. An enemy is approaching. Enemy. Enemies of information given by liquors, not monsters. Then there is only one possibility, the comers are professionals like them. Immediately, Jing Mu, who had been bored before, suddenly became alert. Be careful. Hearing Zheng Mu's sudden warning, Ling Bingyue and Ling Bingyue, who had just dealt with a half-mutilated ghoul, looked at their rising experience points with joy. It's a serious look. They turned to the direction Zheng Mu was looking at and became alert. Clap clap. There was a burst of applause. Figures came out of the dark alley, each with malicious smiles on their faces. The leading man applauded lightly. As expected of the top few new professionals in Yuntong Middle School this year, TSK TSK, they found us so easily. Both Kai Xinkuan and Ling Binyue shrank their pupils when they saw the person coming. And Zheng Mu has already recognized the identity of the other party. Black Wind Guild. Hearing Zheng Mu's voice, the leading man chuckled and said to a person behind him. Sure enough, he is the bully boy you mentioned. Although he is an unlucky mechanic, he did his homework well. 
Hearing this, the three of Zheng Mu noticed a familiar figure behind each other. Kai Xingkuan immediately clenched his fists. Charter Dragon. Hearing Kai Xingkuan say his name, Zhang Chenglong sneered. I didn't expect to meet you all here, he he, without a strong leader to lead the team, our school girl Lang and Mr. Kai seem to have this little ability. Look at how shabby you are. At this time, Zheng Mu noticed. Whether it is Kai Xingkuan or Lang Bingyue, the equipment on their bodies is really shabby. Since I don't have much demand for equipment, I haven't even considered this issue actively. Even the issue of the equipment on the two of them was ignored by him. On the other hand, this is obviously Zhang Chenglong who has joined the Black Wind Guild, but he is wearing tungsten-colored armor, as well as a sword shield, which is considered complete. Seeing the three people looking over, Zhang Chenglong immediately showed a smug smile on his face. Lift your neck. It doesn't matter if you have a high professional level. This world is all about background. It seems that although Mr. Kai's family is rich, we can't give much support in terms of equipment. I'm different. After joining the Black Wind Guild, all the seniors have taken good care of me. See, I'm all equipped with green excellent equipment. May I ask, among the new professionals in Yuntong Middle School, who can come up with these things? Zheng Mu didn't care about this trash showing his superiority here. He looked at the young man in the lead. What do you want to do? Hearing this question, the young man smiled and said directly. Bound to our Black Wind Guild. Impossible. Before Zheng Mu said anything, Lin Binyue had already raised the weapon in his hand, and chose to refuse without hesitation. Hearing this, the young man didn't seem too surprised and shook his head. Pity. The next moment, a figure suddenly appeared not far behind Lin Binyue, and a short knife with a cold light pierced towards the back of the opponent. Chapter 29 Feel the chill coming from behind. Leng Bingyue, who had already grown up a bit, felt her body stiffen instantly. The crisis of death made her brain seem to lose the ability to think in an instant. She instinctively wanted to turn around, but she could barely see the blade that was stabbing towards her. The weapons and skills in his hands are too late to use. And just when she thought that she might die in the wilderness today, she had already started to rewind her life in her mind. A figure that she had never thought of, suddenly stood in front of her. Boom! Without giving her a chance to think, under the tremendous force, she had already flew upside down. However, the imaginary impact and pain did not come, she only felt that she was suddenly hugged directly by a pair of powerful arms. When he stopped, he looked up and saw Zheng Mu who was covered in cold sweat. At this moment, the other party kept whispering in his mouth. Damn it, do characters with more than 30 levels even use sneak attacks to kill newcomers like us? Where Ling Bingyue was originally standing, a figure in black appeared. At this moment, the other party looked at the dagger in his hand suspiciously, and then stared at Zheng Mu with frowning. Skill. Can it block my backstab? This person is the president of the Black Wind Guild, Xiao Gu. Facing Zheng Mu's questioning, Xiao Gu showed no sense of shame, and lightly raised the weapon in his hand again. I'm a B-level professional, shadow assassin, you said I don't engage in sneak attacks, do I still fight you hard? Saying that, the whole person disappeared in place again. Zheng Mu's eyes flashed coldly. The biggest feature of Shadow Assassin is that it can achieve very thorough stealth in a dark environment. However, today's Xiaogu is doomed to be unlucky. Nanomagnetic field scanning, now it has reached LV3, a 1 minute cooling time, plus a 30 second duration. The opponent's every move is actually in front of his eyes, and there is no possibility of hiding it. The next moment, Zheng Mu suddenly raised the muzzle of the gun in his hand. Bang bang bang. A series of flames burst out from the muzzle of the gun, and in an open space, several flames accompanied by the sound of metal clanging, just after disappearing, Xiao Ku, who was about to attack Kai Xingkuan, appeared in surprise come out. Can you see me? Do mechanics have such skills? Kai Xingkuan broke out in cold sweat when he saw Xiao Gu suddenly appearing not far away from him. Without hesitation, he hastily joined Xing Mu. Be careful yourself, these guys are no more difficult to deal with than those zombies. Getting out of Zheng Mu's arms, Leng Bingyue, 
who was pale and obviously ashamed, took a deep look at the gun in Jing Mu's hand. Suppressing the turbulent waves that surged up in his heart for a short time, he took a deep breath to calm himself down. Bastard! You Black Wind Guild dare to kill us in the wilderness, Yun Tongcheng will not let you go. Kai Shinkuan roared angrily. However, it attracted undisguised ridicule from the members of the Black Wind Guild surrounded by them. Ha ha ha, it seems that Zhang Chenglong's words are really good. He is really a rich second generation who is so stupid. You have said it all. This place is a wilderness. Do you think that on this big night, except for you who appeared in this carrion town so undead, who else would come here? Hearing this, Kai Shinkuan's face turned red instantly, and the rifle in his hand tightened again and again. Seeing that they are approaching step by step, the enemies who have surrounded them to death have lost their size. The young man who walked out first, after seeing Ling Binyue who was guarded by Zheng Mu behind him, greed flashed involuntarily in his eyes. He he, you really deserve to be the school bell. You should be more careful when you start, don't make it too shameful. You can play while it's hot. Now, Ling Binyue's pretty face turned pale, it's unbelievable that these people can be so shameless. But she, who just came out of school for a few days, finally felt a deep sense of fear. The knife in his hand was trembling visibly. And Zheng Mu's eyes also flashed coldly. In his mind, without these guys knowing it, the previously hidden T-800 and liquors have surrounded this place silently. On rotting roofs under dark clouds, in dark alleys. Not a single insect chirped in the bushes. The cold mechanical creations have completed careful deployment, and their guns are aimed at the heads of these guys present. Zheng Mu looked at Xiao Gu who was standing outside. You kill us, don't you need a reason? Just because we refuse to join you. Xiao Gu sneered. Little devil, there is no need to delay, and there is no need to expect anyone to save you at this time. Our Black Wind Guild has always acted like this. It is a little bit more to earn, isn't it? Who made you bold and unlucky? Dare to appear here today. Now, Jing Mu has no intention of chatting anymore. Well, if this is the reason for you to kill us, then I can only say that the reason for you to die here is really ridiculous. As he spoke, he didn't wait for everyone to realize what he meant by this. The next moment, it was like a thunderbolt exploding around. Without hesitation, Zheng Mu pressed Ling Binyue and Kai Xinkuan to the ground. Bang bang bang. Dense flames rushed into the members of the Black Wind Guild continuously. Originally standing outside the encirclement, Zhang Chenglong, who was looking at Zheng Mu and the others who were about to die here with a vicious look on his face, felt a sudden explosion behind him. The whole person was directly pushed forward by a huge force. When the body was still in mid-air, Amidst the crackling sound, there was a red and white thing that was covered with a face. Ah! What? Priest pull someone. Quick, ah! The scene was bloody and full of chaos. Zheng Mu pressed the two of them firmly to the ground, and there were bursts of sharp whistling sounds above his head. Similarly, the members of the Black Wind Guild were shot down to the ground without the slightest precaution. Crispy occupations such as priest and mage. All received the boxed lunch immediately. In the blink of an eye, there were only two or three members left in the Black Wind Guild with more than a dozen members, and they were still relying on the high defense of the tank class and their own skills to support them. Seeing this scene, Xiao Gu looked at Zheng Mu who got up from the ground, his eyes were tearing apart. You bastard! You're playing dirty! Chapter 30 Play Dirty Zheng Mu's eyes were full of vicious sneers. What's wrong with playing dirty? Zheng Mu looked at the corpses all over the place, not only without the slightest fear or guilt, but raised the two guns in his hands again without hesitation. Bang 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 bullets burst out from the muzzle of the gun continuously. With the blessing of the nanomagnetic field scanning, skill, at this moment, even Xiaogu, the B-level shadow assassin with a height of LV-39, has to wash his feet with water today. Under the continuous output of several firepower, and Zheng Mu, an old Yin Bai, was at the side, whenever Xiao Chu entered the stealth state, he was immediately shot out. Seeing that the encirclement is getting smaller and smaller, and the few men around who can still persist. 
Under the explosion of electric grenades one after another, he lay on the ground swinging. The liquor who flew over in an instant chopped off his head with one paw. Xiao Gu, who had been walking by the river for so many years, finally felt a deep sense of fear. Zheng Mu. I admit it, everyone stop, you and I retreat separately, today's incident will be as if it never happened. Hearing this, Zheng Mu sneered disdainfully. Battle analysis LV3, prediction one second in advance allows him to accurately hit the opponent's next move with every bullet. This guy dared to speak hard at this time. President Xiao, you are also an old senior who has been in Yuntong City for so many years, and you have done dirty things for so many years. When it comes to the end, why are you still acting stupid? Do you think you can still run and chat? Immediately, Xiaogu, who was completely suppressed behind a ruined wall, turned completely ashen. No matter what kind of assassin skills he used, he was forced back by these weird guys around him. Whether it's the kind of grenade that can cause strong paralysis after it explodes, or the shotgun that shoots a child, he is not brave enough to resist. Didn't you see that the LV-35 rock shield warrior in the team was instantly understood after a short resistance for a few seconds? Suddenly, Xiao Gu gritted his teeth, knowing in his heart that if he didn't think of a solution today, he might really have to stay here. Zheng Mu. I admit it. I have a treasure map that records the hidden secrets on me. Let me go today, and the things belong to you. Zheng Mu frowned. Hidden secret treasure map. Hee hee, President Xiao, do you think I'm a fool? Didn't you come to Carrion Town at night just to try your luck and see if you can encounter the secret place two days ago? If you really have a treasure map in your hand, why waste time here? As he said that, Xiao Gu immediately felt the encirclement around him, getting closer and closer. There was cold sweat on his forehead, and he didn't dare to waste time. What I said is true. The requirement for the secret realm cannot exceed level 30. I originally wanted to sell it to a big shot. If you don't believe me, you can stop attacking first. I will go out and show it to you personally. My storage bag is bound to me, if I die, you can get nothing. After a long while of silence on Zheng Mu's side, the gunfire finally stopped. Xiao Gu raised his hands with a pale face, and walked out carefully from behind the wall. However, he finally saw clearly what it was that surrounded him. Five tough soldiers with exactly the same appearance, and three animal-shaped metal monsters with four limbs on the ground. Reminiscent of Zheng Mu's profession, Xiao Gu's face turned even paler. Why did he dare to openly and openly prepare to attack the three of them? Was it because of his own strength and the advantage he had on his side that made him unable to see the slightest chance of winning for Zheng Mu and the others? Like crushing an ant to death, I didn't think much about it at all. However, I didn't expect you, young Master Zheng, to be able to create such an outstanding mechanical creation. If it spreads, the rumor of a mechanic's weakness will be destroyed within a few years. It's a pity that Zheng Mu didn't have the slightest intention to talk nonsense with him, and pointed the muzzle of the gun at him. The latter hastily and slowly took out a scroll. Zheng Mu winked at Ling Bingyue who was beside him, and the latter immediately understood and used the probing technique. He didn't lie to you, it's indeed a secret map. Hearing this, Xiao Gu forced a flattering smile on his always gloomy face. Young Master Zheng, you see, my Black Wind Guild is completely finished from now on. Please hold me high and let me go. I promise I will never appear in front of you again. Zheng Mu pondered for a while, and finally waved his hand. The next moment, the circle that originally surrounded the other party opened a gap behind Xiao Chu. Poker, do you really want to let this guy go? We almost died in his hands. On the side, Kai Xinkuan was persuading anxiously, but was interrupted by Zheng Mu directly waving his hand. Said lightly to Xiao Gu. Put down the things, you can leave, I promise, these mechanical creations will never attack you. Hearing this, Xiao Gu put down his things cautiously first, then raised his hands, and stepped back carefully step by step. Looking at the other party's cautious gaze, it was obvious that he was afraid that Zheng Mu would break his promise suddenly. However, Zheng Mu did not move from the beginning to the end. Even Kai Xinkuan and Lin Bingyue, who were beside him, all anxiously hoped that he would wipe out the roots. 
Seeing that he had completely retreated, Xiao Ku finally heaved a sigh of relief. The look in Zheng Mu's eyes also became cold. Zheng Mu, today's matter, I Xiao Gu wrote it down, you. It looks like you're planning to take revenge on me. Zheng Mu raised his eyebrows. Xiao Ku suddenly burst out laughing, anyone could hear the overwhelming anger from that laughter. Ha ha ha. Retaliation. You ruined my hard work, do you think I will just let it go like this? Zheng Mu, ah uh, Zheng Mu, a mechanic is such a worthless profession, and you play it to this point, you are also considered number one, what a pity. After all, she is an innocent doll. Hearing this, Kai Xingkuan, who was standing beside Jing Mu, stomped his feet anxiously. Wanting to say something, suddenly, as if seeing something unbelievable, a pair of eyes almost popped out. Silly looking at the direction behind Xiao Ku. A burst of metallic sound came from behind, Xiao Ku turned around, but found it in astonishment. Behind him, the original ordinary truck turned into a 7 or 8 meter high mechanical titan. Gudong. Swallowing a mouthful of saliva with difficulty, turning around, he saw Zheng Mu's mocking smile. He wanted to say something, but a big metal hand had already grabbed him. Ah! Chapter 31 Being held in the hands of Optimus Prime, the huge force directly broke the bones of Xiao Gu's body. The severe pain made his screams echo in the dark night corpse town, attracting waves of zombie howls to echo. Zheng Mu took a few steps closer, and looked at being held by Optimus Prime, only his head was exposed. The seven orifices have already begun to bleed, Xiao Chu, who has more air intake and less air output. Always with a flat smile on his face. President Xiao, you seem to be out of step with the times. Who said that new professionals who just graduated from school are all fools who don't know the dangers of society? Who is the innocent? Opening one eye with difficulty, every muscle in Xiao Chu's face was twitching. The eyes looked unwillingly at the scroll that was thrown up and down in Jing Mu's hand. It was difficult to say something, but the next moment, Optimus Prime had already caught Jing Mu's eyes. With a click, he suddenly retracted his force. Pfft. Looking at the dripping blood that was squeezed out from the gap between Optimus Prime's metal fingers, and the slender corpse that was thrown on the ground like a broken sack. Vomit. Kai Shinkuan was the first to hold back, lying on the ground and vomited. And Lang Bingyue, who could bear it reluctantly, couldn't bear it anymore after being stimulated by this guy. He took two quick steps and hid directly behind a wall. The sound of retching came in the next second. It took a long time for the two of them to finally recover from their pale complexions. They all stared at Zheng Mu directly, the meaning was self-evident. Zheng Mu could only shrug his shoulders and point to Optimus Prime. This is my strongest whole card now, Transformers Optimus Prime. After finishing speaking, Optimus Prime, who sprayed an unknown liquid from his wrist and washed the blood off his hands, immediately waved to the two of them. Hello, you two. I am the mechanical creation made by Lord Juggernaut, Optimus Prime. He, he can talk. Kai Shinkuan took two steps back in horror, and even Ling Bingyue was shocked. Zheng Mu nodded, then pointed to other mechanical creations that were cleaning the battlefield. It's not just Optimus Prime. In fact, these T-800s can also speak. I installed artificial intelligence systems on them, which have good autonomy. But just as the few people were talking, there were bursts of screams like killing pigs, but they came from behind. They looked back, only to see a T-800 dragging a familiar figure walking towards them. Heh, yeah, this guy is really lucky. Under such an environment, he was able to survive. Kai Shinkuan sneered, isn't this embarrassed figure their good classmate Zhang Chenglong? Zheng Mu, no, young master Zheng, grandpa Zheng, grandpa Kai, your lord let me go. I was wrong, I really knew I was wrong, I never thought they would kill you, they. Looking at Zhang Chenglong, who was kneeling on the ground begging for mercy with snot and tears. Zheng Mu waved his hand, not interested in talking nonsense with this guy at all. It is directly ready to let the T-800 kill the opponent. However, at this time, Kai Shinkuan took the initiative to stand up. Poker, leave this guy to me. Looking at Kai Shinkuan who was serious outside godhood, Zheng Mu also instantly understood what the other party meant. 
nodding his head, he let the opponent walk towards a corner under the leadership of T-800. Why do I always feel that you don't seem to be too surprised by Optimus Prime's appearance? As soon as Kai Shinkuan left, Zheng Mu asked Lang Binyue this question curiously. Lang Binyue rolled his eyes. Who has nothing to do and drives into the wilderness? And, even if you want to be more comfortable, isn't it more convenient to drive off-road? Do you think it's normal for you to drive a big truck? Furthermore, Lang Binyue came to torture his soul as if he was looking at a fool. Which summoner have you ever seen, who didn't leave a summoned creature around to protect him, but sent all the summoned creatures out to fight and drank beer behind him? Forehead. Zheng Mu was stunned. He really didn't think much about this question. In fact, Lang Binyue didn't say for sure, and Xian ate beer and kebabs in the back, it was all because Zheng Mu now as long as the mechanical creations under his command don't die, he himself is always safe. Using Optimus Prime as the last protection is really just the other party's guess. However, this also shows that the girl Lin Binyue has a keen observation. While chatting on his side, Kai Shinkuan came back with a gloomy expression accompanied by several gunshots on the other side. Okay, some people have to pay for their actions and become professionals. In the eyes of those common people, the glory is endless, but we should be clear. We have entered a terrifying Shura field. Zheng Mu patted the other person on the shoulder to comfort him. Kai Shinkuan nodded silently. The matter of the Black Wind Guild made both of them a little mentally exhausted. After Optimus Prime changed back into the truck, he sat directly in the driver's cab, ready to take a good rest. And without them knowing. Outside, the bodies of members of the Black Wind Guild that should have been buried were quietly collected by T-800 and the others. Under the control of Zheng Mu, the machine nest, in the rear compartment opened the door. Send these corpses directly into the machine nest. After the two gradually fell asleep on the seat with even breathing, Zheng Mu carefully entered the machine nest. Can't wait to find Xiao Gu's disgusting corpse. Under the complicated gaze of the Red Queen, she took out the direct drive of the Blood Phoenix Seal. Accompanied by bursts of blood gushing out from Xiao Gu's corpse, it was condensed. In the blink of an eye, the latter turned into a skeleton mummy. In front of Zheng Mu, a blood-red skill book also appeared. Dark Crypt, Dark Knight Assassin of Level 25 skill, summons a Dark Crypt, enters it, and can approach the target silently from the ground in the Dark Knight, launching a sudden blow. Learning Conditions, Assassin Occupations can learn. Seeing this skill attribute, Zheng Mu couldn't help feeling aggrieved by Xiao Ku. If it weren't for the fact that his subordinates were too tightly surrounded, and the skill nanomagnetic field scanning, was too restrained for assassin. After sneaking, whether it is an attack or through this skill, evacuate directly. It's all very easy. TSK TSK TSK, but this is good, but it is cheaper for me. Although assassin can only be used, will this affect me? The corners of Zheng Mu's mouth curled into an arc. Chapter 32 Module Seal Carving LV-1, the cooling time is 7 days. And after using Blood Phoenix Seal, once, it takes a month to use it again. However, if these two abilities are spoken out, it will definitely cause a big shock in the entire Blue Star professional circle. Machine's Nest, is in the middle. After stripping the Dark Crypt, skill book from Xiao Chu, he immediately summoned the liquor he created first. The liquor itself has always been an existence under Zheng Mu who is more inclined to the assassin type. The opponent's first skill Hidden Breath Strike is able to achieve the purpose of stealth like assassin. And in the dark, this skill is even more valuable. If coupled with the Dark Crypt skill, the liquor will become even more dangerous in the future. Without the slightest hesitation, Zheng Mu directly used modular seal cutting. The next moment, Zheng Mu pressed the hand on the liquor's head, and a burst of intense electric current suddenly burst out. While the current flowed through the opponent's whole body, it immediately caused obvious changes in him. First of all, the body has turned into a black lacquer without the slightest reflection. In addition, the limbs have become more slender, and the body has become more streamlined. It also made the liquor, who could definitely be called ugly, a lot cooler. Soon, Zheng Mu saw the words Dark Crypt on the liquor's skill panel. Suddenly he was relieved. 
Fortunately, I didn't have the skills to fail the first time. Since you have a special skill, let me give you a name. Zheng Mu stroked this enhanced version of the liquor, pondered for two seconds, and thought of a name. Black Claw. Claws protruding from the darkness. After finishing strengthening the Black Claws, Zheng Mu asked the Red Queen to freeze the remaining corpses, and he returned directly to the cab. Looking at the two sleeping peacefully, Zheng Mu was also speechless. The position of the co-pilot was changed, and Ling Binyue lay down on the small bed at the back. Just when Zheng Mu was about to put down the chair and go to sleep, suddenly, Optimus Prime turned on the cold wind for no reason. In just a moment, the air temperature in the cab has cooled down. Well. Hearing the sound, Zheng Mu looked back and saw that Ling Binyue had already curled up. Now, Zheng Mu still doesn't know what Optimus Prime is doing. You're a truck, not a wingman. Despite making complaints like this, Zheng Mu got behind very well and put his clothes on the opponent's body. Then he leaned on one side very obediently and began to doze off. The cold air was blowing. After a while, Zheng Mu keenly felt that something had slipped into his bosom. When he opened his eyes, he happened to see Ling Bingyue's delicate little face. When she wakes up, she talks sarcastically to people, but when she's asleep, she's kinda cute. Zheng Mu looked at Ling Binyue amusedly at this moment, as if thinking of something, carefully took out the phone from his pocket, and opened it to take a selfie. Make an I didn't do anything gesture with your hands raised. Click. Early the next morning. With Kai Shinkuen's sneeze, the sleeping people finally woke up. Holy shit, Optimus Prime, Poker said you are smart, it was so cold last night, didn't you say to turn on the heater? Kai Shinkuen complained, seeing his trembling appearance, Zheng Mu touched his nose in embarrassment. When Ling Binyue opened her eyes, the first thing she saw was Zheng Mu's half-smile expression. Feel the heartbeat of the other party that can be clearly heard in the ear. Wow! Lang Binyue sat up straight in an instant, staring blankly at the clothes she was wearing and Zheng Mu's strange expression. His face turned red at a speed visible to the naked eye. There are prepared toiletries in the back compartment. Before Zheng Mu finished speaking, Lang Binyue quickly got out of the cab. Feeling the coat that still smelled of the other party's body in his hand, the corners of Zheng Mu's mouth curled up. There are a little more than two days left before the seven-day clearing mission. After a few people tidied up, they immediately threw themselves into the eradication of zombies in Rotten Corpse Town. You killed 50 years jump zombie LV-19, and got 109 experience points. You kill the ghoul LV-21, get 187 experience points, the purple rare material source of distortion. You have killed jumping zombies for 50 years. One after another, like a waterfall, continuously floated across the panels of Zheng Mu and the others. Zheng Mu didn't use Optimus Prime in broad daylight, but the seven T-800s under his command and the three liquors headed by Black Claw are enough for the three to enjoy what is called a flat upgrade. Of course, the real lying down can still only be Zheng Mu alone. Source of distortion, purple rare material, an extremely rare source of energy bred by ghouls, which seems to contain the reason why ghouls quickly recover damaged parts. It can be used for equipment forging and potion synthesis. The sudden purple light group attracted the attention of the three of them, but after finding out that it was the material, Kai Shinkuen and Ling Bingyue immediately turned their heads away in disappointment. Zheng Mu put away his things, his eyes thoughtful. Soon, it will be another day. When night fell again, everyone, including Zheng Mu, was upgraded to a level. Zheng Mo 17. Leng Bingyue LV 11. Kai Shinkuen LV 11. When Leng Bingyue and the others were sitting in the carriage, enjoying the barbecue, looking at the gloomy corpse town outside, they all looked dazed. This upgrade is too bizarre. Captain Lu Lei led us to two or three levels in Carrion Town for two or three days. Now, with your help, we have been promoted to five or six levels in just three or four days. Kai Shinkuen said with a complicated face, not knowing whether to be excited or frustrated. Their level is considered outstanding among the newcomers of the same class. Among the newcomers in Yuntong City this year, they are definitely the top ones. However, Zheng Mu, who took them to upgrade, 
is also a new professional just like them. Zheng Mu didn't have any special feelings about it. He smiled mysteriously at the two of them. Hurry up and upgrade to level 15, I'll give you some gifts then. Chapter, 33 In a flash, two days passed. During these two days. Although Zheng Mu eats and drinks every day, he looks like he is going on a picnic here. However, the use of the golden hand, at hand has been tightly stuck. In two days, the number of T-800s under his command increased from the original 7 to 9. Three liquors, also increased to 5. If you count Optimus Prime as the trump card, Zheng Mu is now just a mechanical creation, and there are as many as 15. It is not an exaggeration to say that it is a small guild. Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, Class A Mechanic. Level, LV-18020W. HP, 18001800. MP, 18001800. Computing Power, 250400. Power, 40. Agility, 39. Spiritual Power, 42. Constitution, 41. Skills, Combat Analysis LV3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV3, Firepower Reset LV3, Ordnance Transformation LV3, Computing Power Enhancement LV3, Mechanical Cell LV3, Nanomagnetic Field Scanning LV3, Module Seal Cutting LV1, Ghost Step LV3. Mechanical Creations, Transformers Optimus Prime, Liquor 5, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-809. After two days of crazy spawning, Zheng Mu only raised one level. However, Kai Xinkuan and Ling Binyue have already reached LV-15. Ordinary occupations are not like the skills of Zheng Mu's mechanic, each of which needs to be upgraded. Consumes a lot of experience points. Like Ling Binyue, except for a few powerful and high-level skills that need to be upgraded, the power of the rest of the skills basically follows their personal attributes. Up to now, the two of them can easily kill the monsters in Carrion Town without the help of Zheng Mu's mechanical creation. Just after Leng Binyue chopped off the head of a zombie struggling to stand up, a voice suddenly sounded in Zheng Mu's mind. Clearing Mission Corp's town completed. Congratulations to the host, you got. Purple Rare Grade Material Fire Seed Source Body Energy Core 1. Hearing this reward, Zheng Mu, who was basking in the sun leisurely, suddenly stood up from the rocking chair. Fuck, the source of the fire seed? How could I not know about this thing? I had this thing when I synthesized Optimus Prime more than half a month ago. It's just that it was a novice gift pack at the time, and the system directly rewarded him with the things he needed for a full set of blueprints. Now. System, I have the energy core of the fire seed source body in the blueprint of Optimus Prime, so don't I say that I can make another Optimus Prime? Ding, the host currently does not have other components to build Optimus Prime, and cannot create a complete Optimus Prime. However, the energy core of the fire source body is the core component of the Transformers, the host only needs to prepare other alternative components, and then the Transformers with unknown functions can be combined. After receiving this reply from the system, a lot of plans and assumptions immediately appeared in Jing Mu's mind. Without the slightest hesitation, Dang even yelled loudly at the two who were about to continue searching for the monster. Pack up the loot, let's return to Yungang City. Whether it's his own level 18 or Lang Bingyue's level 15, they are already qualified to participate in the assessment of Xingqin University, and there is no need to continue to stay in the wilderness. On the way back, since the two already knew about the existence of Optimus Prime, Zheng Mu didn't pretend to drive anymore. Remember what I told you before, after you have reached the 15th level, I will give you gifts. Zheng Mu said with a smile on his face. However, as soon as the words fell, both Kai Xinkuan and Ling Binyue shook their heads hastily. What kind of gift do you want, you took us half a month to rise to the 15th level, even if you are a brother, I can't always take advantage of you. Kai Xinkuan shook his head repeatedly. Zheng Mu ignored their reactions, and directly took out the things he had prepared a long time ago from the storage backpack. Automatic Rifle, Supervisor, comma, 
LV-15, Purple Rare Weapon, Mechanic Xing Mu's Work, Unlimited Bullets, 25% Increase in Shooting Speed, 25% Increase in the Power of Gunner Professional Skills, 80% Increase in Damage to Targets Within 300 Meters Percent. Conditions of Use, Gunner Occupation Glory of the Warlord 33, LV-15, Purple Rare Suit, Including Warguard Armor, Warguard Trousers, Warguard's Combat Boots, The Work of Mechanic Xing Mu. Increase the user by 300% physical and magic defense, 200% physical damage, reduced skill MP consumption by 30%. You can accumulate war medals by killing targets, and the number of war medals reaches 10, and the damage of the next attack will increase. Kai Shinkuan froze in place, but the shaking movement couldn't last any longer. There was a deep smile in Jing Mu's eyes. So, young Master Kai doesn't seem to like these things anymore, so I'll. Seeing Jing Mu making a move to retract, Kai Shinkuan finally couldn't hold back any longer. He jumped on it. Father wait a minute. Since it was given by the adoptive father, how dare Kuan refuse it, my son thanks the adoptive father. Looking at Kai Shinkuan's funny and solemn appearance, even Ling Bingyue, who was sitting in the co-pilot, couldn't help showing his white teeth slightly, and the moment he turned his head, his eyebrows and eyes were completely curved. But immediately, the two seemed to realize something. Turning his head for a moment, he stared at the thing in front of him in horror. Machinist Cheng Mu works. The clear words on the panel made Ling Bingyue and Kai Shinkuan feel their brains buzzing. This, this is what you did. Aren't you a mechanic? This. Seeing the rare Ling Bingyue losing his composure, Cheng Mu smiled lightly and waved his hands with pride. Some tricks that are not on the table, not worth mentioning, not worth mentioning ha ha ha. After repeated questioning by the two, Cheng Mu finally revealed his skill ordinance transformation. Hearing this, Ling Bingyue and Kai Shinkuan had known each other for a long time, and they both gasped. What kind of tasteless A-level occupation is this? This is clearly an SS-class job that ordinary people can't play at all. Chapter, 34 SS-level occupation Even when they first awakened their professions, they didn't dare to think that they would be able to awaken the SS-level professions one day. In fact, professionals of this level are rare in the entire country. Every SS-level professional, once he grows up, must be a representative of the top combat power of an era in the future. However, during this period of getting along, the two of them already realized the horror of the mechanic, when they heard that the mechanic actually had ordnance transformation, which made the blacksmith want to hit the wall with the sky-defying skills. The two of them felt bad in an instant. What a level professional mechanic? This is clearly an SS level occupation deliberately buried by Heavenly Dao. Even an S level profession cannot describe the horror of a mechanic at this moment. There are summoners' rogue tactics, undead mages' life saving skills, and the unreasonable skills of killing assassin like occupations. Now, even lifelike occupations cannot escape the fate of being compared with them. So, a purple rare gunslinger suit that can be sold for at least 5 billion dragon coins is just synthesized by you with a team of blue elite level equipment? Zheng Mu shrugged, seeming to think of something, and said with some complaints. The cooldown time of the mechanic skills is too long. Do you know how painful it is to wait for 3 hours to use a skill once? Leng Bingyue. Kai Shinkuan smiled obsequiously, Father, you are right in everything. At this moment, Kai Shinkuan's heart is full of excitement for his brother, who has a great future, and the excitement of having such a big thick leg in his arms. Sure enough, he was right. From childhood to adulthood, Zheng Mu has always been the most sensible and excellent person in his heart. How can God bury such a person? Seeing that Kai Shinkuan couldn't wait to put the equipment on himself, Zheng Mu's eyes turned to Ling Bingyue who was in the co-pilot position. My skills are actually limited. For example, equipment that is biased towards magic professions, such as magic armor, magic robes, etc. I can't modify it. Hearing this, Leng Bingyue's mood suddenly fell, but on the surface she nodded to express her understanding. However, just when she thought that Zheng Mu didn't prepare any equipment for herself, Zheng Mu suddenly took out a long knife with a sheath from his storage pocket. There are blue and purple floral patterns on the scabbard, 
and a string of jade in the shape of plum blossoms hangs on the handle of the knife. Although there is no increase in elemental attributes, physical defense and skill damage increase, as well as the increase in attack speed, are good. Lang Binyue looked at the information panel that popped up from the long knife in front of her, feeling her mind was blank. Codename, Mei, comma, LV-15, Purple Rare Weapon, the work of Mechanic Xingmu, increases physical damage by 500%, increases skill damage by 120%, and attack speed by 30%. Conditions of use, available for warrior and assassin classes. Such a powerful attribute, why did you say it from your mouth, it feels like you think this thing is rubbish. Looking at Leng Bingyue, the beauty of Bing Shan, her expression became so wonderful after seeing this knife. The corners of Zheng Mu's mouth curled into an arc. Then he took out another thing from the storage backpack. It was the Moon Hidden Boots obtained in the secret realm before. Moon Hidden Boots, LV-15, Purple Rare Equipment, increases the user's movement speed by 30%, and increases the duration of stealth skills by 50%. Note, this equipment requires the skill, stealth, to be equipped. This is a piece of equipment I got from fighting monsters. I don't need it. It just so happens that you have the skill of stealth. You just come to use it. Watching Xing Mu pick it up casually, there are two more purple rare items. Both Kai Xingkuan and Ling Bingyue were completely dumbfounded. Suddenly, the two seemed to think of something at the same time. You entered the secret place in Rotten Town that night. Zheng Mu was not surprised that the two of them could think of this, and nodded directly. Hiss. Kai Xingkuan looked at Zheng Mu now with horror. Captain Lu Lei told us that the secret realm is recommended to be challenged by four LV-30 people in a team. Have you passed the level? Zheng Mu nodded again. Although there were some twists and turns, it went smoothly. Listening to Zheng Mu talking about this kind of thing so easily, as if he was telling them what they had for dinner two nights ago, Kai Xingkuan didn't want to say anything anymore. Numb. Really can't compare with this perverted guy at all. However, Kai Xingkuan is not bad at the moment, and Ling Bingyue, who is an A-level professional like Xing Mu, is really uncomfortable at this moment. She wanted to surpass this guy since she was a child. I was suppressed by the opponent this time in my studies. Now that he has become a professional, he seems to be able to win back a victory, but in the end the loss is even more complete. Seeing that the two of them stopped talking, Zheng Mu touched it from his bosom. Pulled out a ring. In Wind Ring, LV-15, Purple Rare Level Jewelry, increases the wearer's wind damage by 50%, and increases MP recovery speed by 30%. Seeing Zheng Mu handing the ring towards her, Leng Bingyue, whose brain was still in a state of confusion last moment, suddenly felt. Suddenly thought of something. A small face instantly turned red. Confusion, embarrassment, and a trace of joy that she didn't want to admit, under the interweaving of various emotions, Ling Bingyue just sat there blankly. I don't need this ring either. As a cold wind swordsman, you happen to have wind damage, which can increase your strength a lot. Now when the Holy Purity University takes the exam, the three of us can take care of each other. As he said, Zheng Mu didn't give this silly little girl a chance to react at all. He directly reached out his hand and put the ring on the other party's left ring finger under the other party's sluggish gaze. Oh oh oh. Boss is awesome. In the back row, Kai Shinkuan shouted excitedly when he saw this scene. I just said, apart from you, the boss, who else is worthy of a super beautiful woman like Ling Daxioa? Immediately, Ling Bingyue's face turned red as if it could bleed. One hand touched the position of the ring and wanted to remove it, but for some reason, the ring seemed to be sucked into his hand. Just can't take it off. Leng Bingyue didn't say a word until she returned to Yuntong City, she kept her head down the whole time, until Kai Xingkuan said goodbye and went home. Well, do you want to meet my mother she was very worried about you before. Chapter, 35 To Leng Bingyue's house Leng Bingyue's sudden invitation caught Jing Mu by surprise. You, don't think too much, it's just that she sent me a message and wanted to see you, so I. Looking at Leng Binyue who turned his head aside, but the ears were obviously rosy. 
To be honest, the other party's at a loss for the iceberg beauty at the moment is really so cute that Zheng Mu couldn't help but smile a little. How many scapegoats did and Qing bear for all these years because of this girl's arrogance? Back all the way, I didn't even check my phone. How did you know that Aunt Qing sent a message? However, Zheng Mu sees through and doesn't tell the truth. Aunt Qing has treated her well since she was a child, even if she is not her own, she can be regarded as treating her as her own. It was my cheap dad who couldn't understand his feelings, who ruined his youth. As a son, I need compensation after all. Uh, since Aunt Qing wants to see me, I'm definitely going to have a look. However, before that, we have to get rid of this time's harvest. There is still some time before the entrance examination of Xingqing University. Going to do something. To this, Leng Bingyue just nodded. This time their gains were not insignificant. On the way back, several people had been estimated. Although Zheng Mu used many of the blue elite level equipment in ordnance transformation, to give them a set of purple rare level equipment. But the remaining in used materials and white green quality equipment are calculated to be about 600 million dragon coins. 600 million. According to the distribution model discussed by the three, Leng Bingyue and the others took the materials given by Zheng Mu. He was upgraded to LV15 by Zheng Mu again, so naturally he can no longer ask for anything. When Zheng Mu sold out the monster materials in the corpse town several times, the number on the account immediately rose to 640 million dragon coins. Sir, it's you again, are you going to buy something this time? At the previous counter, when Zheng Mu appeared again, the beautiful teller recognized him immediately. After all, it hasn't been long. Zheng Mu nodded. I want to see if you have any purple rare materials this time, please show me the list. Hearing this, Leng Bingyue, who was standing behind Xing Mu, couldn't help but take a deep look at his back. Purchase purple rare materials and what to do with them. At this moment, she couldn't think of anything. Just Blue's elite T-800s and liquors have been able to lead them to kill all directions in Carrion Town. Even the Black Wind Guild, which had been entrenched in Yuntong City for many years and was regarded as a cancer, was destroyed. How terrifying would a purple rare mechanical creation be? Thinking of the appearance of Optimus Prime transformed into a steel titan that day, Lin Bingyue couldn't help touching the ring on his hand. I seem to be pulled farther and farther away by the other party. However, at this moment, Zheng Mu is already holding the tablet, and began to pick out the materials he needs on it. Golden Hand The effect is very obvious. According to the different functions and characteristics of materials, it will be transformed into mechanical creations with similar functions. And he only needs to list some materials with functional characteristics that he needs. Soon, he completed the choice. Five pieces of purple rare materials will cost you 270 million in total. Look. Zheng Mu handed over the card directly. Seeing the account balance plummeted by half, Zheng Mu was already getting used to such a large sum of money in and out. Compared with money, one's own strength is more important. As the level gets higher and higher in the future, the price of the monster loot that can be obtained will naturally become higher and higher, and the money will basically become a string of numbers in the end. Are you going to create a new mechanical creation? Are you sure? As soon as she walked out of the trading center, Leng Bingyue couldn't help asking. Zheng Mu smiled slightly at this, and pondered for two seconds. Be sure, it's not too big, but it's enough. As he spoke, Zheng Mu opened his hand slightly, with a weird smile. No more, no less, just enough to grasp. Leng Bingyue Leng Bingyue's home is not far from Zheng Mu's home, on a commercial street. Aunt Qing herself all people is cold and elegant, it sounds like the name of an iceberg beauty, but she is a super gentle woman that Zheng Mu can't figure out, and her cheap father can refuse. Leng Qingya is a life professional, and the B-level loose spirit weaver girl can be regarded as a well-known existence in Yuntong City. There is a pretty good armor shop. The cloth armor she made is in the same city, and it can be said that there is no market for it. In addition, I am gentle and beautiful, and the suitors don't know much. And when Zheng Mu came here with Leng Bingyue, the Leng Qingya who heard the movement came out of the kitchen wearing a home dress and an apron. Hey, 
This girl Binyue finally knows to call you over, come and show and Qin quickly, she's lost weight, it looks like she didn't have a good rest during the time she just woke up. Seeing my mother walking up to Jing Mu as soon as she entered the door. Leaving his daughter aside, he greeted this guy with greetings, as if seeing his own son. Leng Binyue felt as if a lemon had exploded in her mouth. I watched helplessly as my mother pulled Jing Mu to sit him down, and put the obviously newly prepared fruits and snacks in front of him, while I continued to work in the kitchen. Leng Binyue didn't know what to say. If it weren't for the fact that he ran out of the orphanage back then and was met by the other party when he was wandering alone in the city. There is a high probability that Leng Qingya will consider Jing Mu as his godson, right? Wait until Leng Qingya prepared a table of dishes in large and small dishes and called the two of them to the table. Leng Binyue stared at Jing Mu with a gritted expression. It was like a silent trial. At the dining table, without any surprise, Jing Mu's bowl was already piled up into a hill in the blink of an eye. After a meal, Jing Mu was quite satisfied, but Leng Binyue felt like chewing wax. Finally, just as Jing Mu was about to get up and leave, Leng Binyue hadn't had time to be happy. Leng Qingya's words immediately froze her smile in place. Binyue, did you accept your big brother's marriage proposal? The cold and elegant words were surprising, however, following the direction of the other party's gaze, he saw the ring in his hand. Leng Binyue didn't know how to explain. Chapter 36 Stand at the door. Zheng Mu looked at Leng Binyue who was at a loss, but there was a smile on the corner of his mouth. Just kidding, how could he not know what wearing a ring on his left ring finger meant? Only the girl Leng Binyue didn't pay attention to this matter at all. Facing Leng Qingya's questioning at this moment, she was simply confused and at a loss. However, Zheng Mu did not intend to explain or help at all, and smiled lightly. Say goodbye directly. Standing downstairs, looking at the quiet night sky, Zheng Mu could almost imagine that according to the kind of mother-in-law eyes that Leng Qingya looked at him just now, Leng Binyue tonight would definitely have a very sour life. Afterwards, Zheng Mu turned on the phone as if he thought of something funny. A picture message was sent out. At home, Leng Qingya is explaining the misunderstanding. Facing Leng Qingya, I can give you a purple rare ring, yet you still say you too are fine. Besides you, has your big brother ever given such an expensive gift to any other girl? Why is he right? You're so nice, don't you understand? These successive questions. Leng Binyue was completely helpless. When the phone vibrated, she opened it suspiciously, and saw the photo sent by Zheng Mu above. Leng Binyue's pretty face suddenly changed, and she hurriedly wanted to close it. But the sharp-eyed Leng Qingya had already seen it clearly. Hey, stubborn girl, you have already slept in someone's arms, and you still said no, look at this cute appearance, how safe you are. Leng Binyue gritted her teeth, Zheng Mu, I'm going to kill you. She never thought that this guy even took a photo, and now she couldn't explain it completely. However, I don't know why, when things went to this point. Instead, she was inexplicably relieved. On the other side, the next day. Zheng Mu washed up early in the morning, and the first thing he did was to head towards Kai's house immediately. It is not the first time Zheng Mu has come to Kai Shinkuan's house in the wealthy villa area of Yuntong City. However, upon hearing his arrival this time, the Kai family was significantly more enthusiastic than before. He had just walked to the gate when Kai Shinkuan and his parents came out to greet him in person. Oh, Xiao Mu is here, and we said we were going to come to thank you. Look at you, why did you bring something when you came to uncle? Kai's father had a look of enthusiasm, his son had been playing with Zheng Mu since he was a child. For Zheng Mu, they have some considerations, and there is no problem with his personality. A while ago, I heard that he was unlucky enough to meet a poor job, and father Kai felt a little pity for him. However, now Zheng Mu is the real deal, surprising them. The well-known tasteless mechanic, when he came to him, he directly became a butcher in the wilderness. Zheng Mu glanced at Kai Xinkuan who was at the side, and the latter immediately gave him a reassuring look. It seems that this guy is not stupid enough to say everything, he should only talk about the mechanical creation he made and the set of equipment. As for the specific mechanical creations, Kai Xinkuan should also know to keep his mouth shut. 
With the warm welcome of the Kai family, Zheng Mu finally walked into the villa of the Kai family. After exchanging a few words of pleasantries, Zheng Mu finally expressed his purpose of coming today. Uncle, apart from looking for Xin Kuan, I came here today to get rid of you. As he said that, Zheng Mu directly took out a blueprint that he spent money to find someone to deal with urgently last night. Spread it out in front of Father Kai. The latter, as a person who runs a construction company in Yuntong City, can tell at a glance that this drawing is a manufacturing drawing of a villa. Uncle, you have a wide range of connections. I want you to help me find out. I want to build an all-steel structure villa according to this blueprint. See if you can help me with this. Hearing that Jing Mu wanted to build an all-steel structure villa, Father Kai frowned. Is that thing a villa? That's a fort, right? However, as an exquisite mind, he didn't ask this question. After looking at the drawings for a while, he found that the structure above was actually not complicated. After pondering for two seconds, he nodded in agreement. Leave this matter to my uncle. I will stop the project at hand, and I will be able to help you build it in about a month. You don't need to pay for the expenses. I will treat it as my elder and give it to you to celebrate. A gift for career awakening. Hearing this, Zheng Mu didn't refuse, and after a few words of thanks, he accepted it. After leaving Kai's house, Kai Shinkuan followed Zheng Mu on the road. Poker, why did you build that villa? You won't tell me that you plan to build that thing into a mechanical creation, right? When Kai Shinkuan said this conjecture, he felt full of absurdity. Judging from the drawings just now, Zheng Mu's all-steel structure villa is larger than his own four-story villa. Only the main body covers an area of less than a thousand square meters. Although he didn't know the specific skills of a mechanic, he built this thing into a mechanical creation. No matter how you look at it, it is absolutely whimsical. Zheng Mu smiled lightly at this. Success or failure actually requires some luck, but I will explain too much. Take the other party directly and start various purchases in Yuntong City. What industrial water machine, special glass, wiring and equipment, etc. A bunch of things were purchased, not to mention spending a lot of money. It also took Zheng Mu several days. The energy of the Kai family in Yuntong City is really good, and now that there is a B-level professional Kai Shinkuan, other dignitaries in Yuntong City are also willing to sell the Kai family's face. On the second day, the construction of the villa in Zheng Mu's drawing started at a construction site in the city. Soon half a month passed in the blink of an eye. Zheng Mu is studying the future planning route at home this day. The phone rang suddenly. It was the call from the Department of Education, asking a new professional like him to go to the Department of Education immediately to register for the entrance examination of various colleges and universities. When Zheng Mu arrived, he saw Kai Xinkuan and Ling Bingyue at the gate of the Department of Education, which was crowded with people. Seeing Zheng Mu coming, the latter snorted coldly and walked directly inside. Obviously, the previous incident still haunted her. What Zheng Mu didn't know was that these days, Aunt Qing, that woman who loves brains, has already instilled in Ling Bingyue some things that mature women should know. This made her feel upset when she saw Zheng Mu now. Chapter 37. Okay, if everyone is here, come to me to get the registration form, fill it out and go to the registration window of the corresponding university, complete the professional information registration, and then you can prepare for the next assessment. The voice of class teacher Su Qingguang rang out, and the students who were chattering about their energy for upgrading in the wilderness were all quieted down. Student Leng Bingyue, which college do you plan to apply for? With your A-level Howling Swordsman's capital, now that a month has passed, it will definitely be no problem to reach the tenth level. Yes, if I have Bingyue's professional qualifications, I will directly apply for Xingqin University. Actually, Beiwu University is also good. I heard from a cousin of mine that this year, several top professional colleges in Longwo will be reshuffled. Among them, Xingqin University and Beiwu University must increase their investment. Powerful. Hey! I'm a C-level professional. Honestly, I can just find a university that is easy to get into. I don't dare to choose. C-level is not bad, anyway, it is still a buff occupation, like those common occupations of D-level, they did not come today at all, 
they have given up, and all of them joined the guild one after another. The class next door was talking, and Zheng Mu turned his head to look, but it happened to meet Ling Bingyue's eyes. The latter snorted again and turned his head away. However, whether it was intentional or unintentional, Jing Mu suddenly saw the words Holy Qin University filled in the other party's registration form. Smiling faintly, he murmured Death Tsundra again in his heart. Jing Mu and Kai Xingquan who was on the side looked at each other, and without the slightest hesitation, filled in the name of Xingqin University on the registration form. He also filled in his middle school information, occupation name, and grade. Su Qingguang has been watching the actions of the two of them, and he couldn't help being excited. Not to mention Jing Mu, although A-level occupations meet the admission requirements of Xingqin University, but the combat effectiveness is too weak. However, Kai Xingkuan is a good seed in their class that deserves special attention. A B-level occupation is still a very powerful golden gun shooter, and the late skills are thrown on the battlefield and the wilderness, which are all good combat effectiveness. If our Yuntong Middle School is lucky this year, if it really comes, there may be three professionals from Xingqing University. Su Qingguang's smile became brighter and brighter when he thought of the generous rewards he was about to receive as a head teacher. At the same time, Zheng Mu and the others have already walked towards the registration window together. In a huge indoor space, it is like the talent trading market in the previous life. The admissions and registration offices of colleges and universities with different brands are waiting here. Xingqin University is a well-known top institution in Longwu, Jing Mu and the others saw each other's brand at a glance, in the most prominent position. But at the moment, this place is already full of people queuing up to sign up. Although the assessment conditions of Xingqin University are very harsh, there are not a few people who want to fight hard. Among the first-tier colleges, the admissions teams of Xingqin University and Beiwu University are definitely the longest. After waiting in line quietly for a while, it was Zheng Mu's turn soon. The first is Leng Binyue who is at the front. Level A, Cold Wind Swordsman, not bad, not bad, although the assessment of our first-tier universities is very difficult, but a qualification like Student Leng, as long as you take it seriously, it is very easy to pass the assessment. Okay, you can go to the back to register the professional information. After receiving Leng Binyue's application form, the somewhat bald person in charge of Xingqin University nodded in satisfaction, and after glancing at Leng Binyue's image, the nodding became more intense. Leng Binyue frowned slightly, walked towards the back without saying anything. Next was Kai Xingquan. In the eyes of the person in charge, the information about the B-level golden gun shooter was just slightly raised, and he was directly asked to register later. Not a single redundant word or compliment was said. Until it was Zheng Mu's turn. Looking at the information on the registration form in his hand, the bald person in charge suddenly frowned. A-level mechanic? Is there such a job in A-level? This classmate, did you fill in it wrong? Hearing this question, the astonishment in Zheng Mu's eyes flashed away. But I still shook my head, sorry, I didn't make a mistake, why don't you think about it again? At this time, a person sitting behind the bald man seemed to have thought of something, and whispered a few words in the latter's ear. Suddenly, the bald man looked at Zheng Mu with obvious disgust. After pondering for two seconds, he shook his head. Pushed Zheng Mu's registration form in front of him. If it's another A-level professional, I won't hesitate to give you the level information, but the mechanic. The man paused, his face showing obvious disdain. The mechanic is too weak. It can neither fight nor support. It can't even compare with the lowest D-level life occupation. This student, you need to know. Our Xingqin University shoulders the huge responsibility of cultivating the top professionals for the Dragon Kingdom, and not everyone can enter. So, please leave you have come to the wrong place. You will not pass the examination of Xingqin University at all. As he said that, the man shook his head with an expression of I'm doing it for your own good. Signal Zheng Mu to leave. The sudden change made this side immediately attract the eyes of the surroundings. At the side, I wanted to see the lively Beiwu University recruiting and graduating personnel, but when I heard that Zheng Mu turned out to be a mechanic, after thinking about it, they all shook their heads. Not to mention that Xingqing University doesn't accept it, and Beiwu University doesn't want it either. 
the surrounding gaze made Jing Mu's face turn cold. Sir, if I remember correctly, you can sign up for the assessment as long as you fulfill the conditions, right? Your ST. Qin University's requirements are B-level and above occupations, plus newcomers who meet LV10. You can sign up. I think I should meet these two requirements, right? Hearing that Zheng Mu dared to refute himself, sitting in this position for a long time, the bald man who had already cultivated an arrogant attitude, his face suddenly turned cold. Okay, we don't need the rubbish job of a mechanic, so stay where you are cool. Hearing the other party's unreasonable and contemptuous words, Zheng Mu's face turned completely cold. He took a deep look at the guy in front of him, as if he wanted to remember him. Then he looked in the direction of Beiwu University beside him. However, before he could take a step forward, the person in charge over there waved his hand directly. Sorry, mechanics are too special. Our Beiwu University is not considering recruiting them now. Please find another one. Now, all the surroundings will stare sharply at him. Zheng Mu's face turned livid. It was detected that the host chose the path of promotion, and the system issued a promotion task. Please apply for the Southwest Military Military University and get the best results in the assessment of Longwa's first-class universities. Reward, Red Brave Blueprint 1. Chapter, 38. It was detected that the host chose the path of promotion, and the system issued a promotion task. Please apply for the Southwest Military Military University and get the best results in the assessment of Longwa's first-class universities. Reward, Red Brave Blueprint 1. Seeing that he hadn't said anything yet, as if he was afraid that he would speak, Beiwu University took the lead in rejecting him. Zheng Mu's face was gloomy, hesitating how to deal with today's unexpected situation. The sudden voice in his head made him slightly startled. The system actually pointed him away. Southwest Military Attaché University This university is also a first-class university in the Dragon Kingdom, but it is mainly responsible for providing junior talent training, equipment upgrades, and some deeper fields for the Dragon Kingdom's professional army. However, in recent years, the situation of the Southwest Military Military University has deteriorated year by year. Before coming here, when the students in the next class were discussing, the protagonist of the topic of reshuffling the cards in their mouths was Southwest Military Military University. It is said that after this year, Southwest Military Attaché University will face relegation. Turning his head and looking in other directions, the admissions entrance of Southwest Military Military University is still easy to find. It's not because the other party has also been brilliant in a first-class university, but there are really few people. Looking back at the admissions offices of other first-class universities around him, all eyes were focused on him at the moment. When Zheng Mu looked at the admissions gates of other universities, the people in charge turned their eyes away. Seeing this scene, the bald person in charge of Xingqin University suddenly showed a sneer of disdain. Let's go, don't be in front of the students behind, what A-level professional mechanic, isn't it just a common person with a professional panel? Zheng Mu's fists were clenched. For a long time, Zheng Mu has not given much in-depth consideration to the choice of colleges and universities in his mind. After all, he has a system, and in the future, the profession of mechanic will definitely be brought to the top of the world by him. It doesn't matter which college you choose. That being the case, he naturally directly chose the best Xingqin University as his goal. Now it seems. Zheng Mu didn't say anything about the indignant words of the 30 years of Hadong and the 30 years of Hashi. However, he remembered all the colleges and universities that rejected him today and didn't even give him a qualification for examination. He took his own registration form and walked towards the window of Southwest Military Military University where no one lined up at all. Ha ha ha, a university that is declining in the West is suitable for students with no future. The voice of the bald person in charge of Xingqin University came from behind. Zheng Mu still didn't say anything, but he had already made up his mind. All the students of Xingqin University who he met in the future will suffer from old crimes. Seeing Zheng Mu leave suddenly, Leng Bingyue, who was about to register, hurriedly grabbed the staff. When she heard that Zheng Mu was turned away, Kai Xingkuan, who was standing beside her, was about to explain something, but was stopped by Leng Bingyue. Sorry, I think I still need to reconsider. 
let's forget about the registration first. Saying that, regardless of the stunned staff behind him, he directly chased after Xing Mu's back. Seeing this, Kai Xingkuan glared angrily at the blind and bald person in charge, and chose to leave without hesitation. Hello, I'm an A-level mechanic, do you accept it at Southwest Military Military University? An abrupt voice came from behind. The director of admissions at Southwest Military Military University, who was dressed in the uniform of the Dragon Kingdom, was still anxiously discussing the admissions issue with his companions. But he was startled by the voice behind him. Seeing Zheng Mu with sword-browed star eyes and sharp godhood eyes standing in front of him. The person in charge was taken aback for a moment, and then took the registration form in his hand without the slightest hesitation. We act according to the regulations. If you meet all the requirements, you will naturally be qualified for the first-class university examination, but whether you can enter our Southwest military officer depends on your own ability. In the words, there was no contempt for Zheng Mu's career as a mechanic, which made Zheng Mu feel a little relieved. Without the slightest hesitation, he directly changed the information on the registration form to Southwest Military Military University. But when he was filling out the form, an arm was placed directly on his shoulder. You didn't say a word when you left poker. Luckily, classmate Leng Bingyue has quick hands and eyes, otherwise the registration will be completed directly. Looking back, isn't it Kai Xingkuan and the others? Zheng Mu raised his eyebrows. Xingqin University is very famous. If you enter it, the Kai family will definitely give you more resources. But if you come here, you have heard the specific situation. The situation of Southwest Military Military University is not good. However, Kai Xingkuan picked up the pen without hesitation and started to change the information. As for Leng Binyue at the side, without waiting for Zheng Mu to speak, he directly vetoed it. My mother asked me to report to the same school as you. A warm current flashed through Zheng Mu's heart, but on the surface he rolled his eyes. Yes, Aunt Qin innocently took the blame again without knowing it. When the three handed the registration form to the person in charge, the latter's eyes almost popped out when he saw the information on it. Leng Binyue is an A-level cold wind swordsman. Kai Xingkuan is a Class B Golden Gun Shooter. Zheng Mu is an A-level Mechanic. Now, Shindu became more serious when he looked at Zheng Mu. Let's not talk about this, just how much potential the boy named Zheng Mu has, and what the future holds. But being able to make two friends with great potential willingly jump into the fire pit with him, the charm of his personality is a good highlight. However, the transfer of Leng Binyue and Kai Xingkuan here is seen by the heads of other institutions such as Xingqin University. They all shook their heads and lamented the youthful heart. The bald person in charge of Xingqin University sneered even more, and waved his hands without the intention of letting the staff go over to dissuade him. Hee hee, it's just an A level and a B level. Our Xingqin University's admissions in other big cities have already recruited SS level professionals. These two are destined to regret today's impulsiveness. Never mind. In his words, the A-level professional who was named a genius and new star in Yuntong City, in his mouth, there is no difference between the humble and the D-level common professional. On the other side, the principal of Yuntong Middle School who was chatting with the leaders of the Department of Education, and Su Qingwang, Xing Mu's class teacher, also received the news. When I heard that Zheng Mu gave up Xingqin University with a good seed from the school, and went to a Southwest military officer who will not be relegated next year and fell out of a first-class university, I only felt my blood pressure rise. He rushed over quickly, and saw the three people who were going through the formalities. The principal of Yuntong Middle School shouted hurriedly as if seeing his mother dying. Stop! Chapter, 39 Stop! There was a hysterical roar instantly attracted everyone's attention. However, as the principal of Yuntong Middle School, Gung Shingwa couldn't control his image. He stepped forward and snatched the registration form from the person in charge of admissions. Seeing that the companion behind him was about to make a move, the person in charge shook his head to stop him, and didn't say anything, quietly watching everyone's reaction. Student Leng Binyue, Student Kai Shinkuan, do you know what choice you made today? It is an important choice that will affect your future life. It's not a joke. 
what are you doing here without going to the better Xingqin University? Hearing this, in the admissions window, the faces of several men in military uniforms suddenly turned cold. What's the difference between this and being magnified by someone's face? Their Southwest Military Military University is indeed in a very bad situation, but no matter how bad it is, they are also the heroes who have supported the Dragon Kingdom for decades. Such a grandiose expression of contempt for their university made these people very angry. Afterwards, Su Qingguang, Zheng Mu and Kai Xingkuan's class teacher, and Leng Bingyue's class teacher rushed over out of breath, and the first thing they did was check to see if they had the registration form in hand. When he saw that Gung Xinghua had already taken the registration form, he breathed a sigh of relief. Kai Xingkuan. What are you messing around at this time? Does your father know what you've done today? You're joking about your future. Su Qingguang reprimanded him bitterly. However, Kai Xingkuan has the same head, just like when he was caught skipping class, a dead pig is not afraid of boiling water. But he didn't let go, and chose Southwest Military Military University if he was bitten to death. On the other side, Leng Binyue silently shook her head in the face of repeated persuasion from the head teacher. Neither explain nor accept. Watching the scene stalemate for a while, Gung Xinghua and the others finally focused their attention on Zheng Mu who had been neglected by them. Su Qingguang felt the majesty from the principal, and felt sorry for him. But he could only bite the bullet and persuade. Student Zheng Mu, you have always been the most sensible person in the class. You are very mature. You should know how much today's incident will affect the future lives of the two of them. If you make a wrong step, it will be a lifetime loss. They treat you as a friend, you can't be selfish just because of friendship and so-called face. This is a strong statement. And the person in charge of the Southwest Military Military University, who had been silent for a long time, finally spoke. He looked at Zheng Mu and the others solemnly. Student Zheng Mu, Student Leng Bingyue, and Student Kai Xingkuan, although the three of you can choose Southwest Military Military University, as the school, we are also very happy. But our Southwest Military Attaché University is a university that serves the army. We have always said what we have to say, and we don't hide it from you. We don't want you to resent us for hiding something from you after you join us in the future. The person in charge looked directly at the few people, full of calm. Our Southwest Military Attaché University is indeed at risk of being relegated. If you choose to join us at this time, first of all, during the assessment, you must be assessed according to the standards of a first-class university. It's possible for you to stop before this line so you can figure out how much your loss will be. In addition, even if you enter our Southwest Military Military University with the conditions of a first-class university, once our downgrade is confirmed, the resources and various conditions will definitely be reduced accordingly, and you will inevitably suffer losses at that time. Compared with students from other first-class universities, there are a lot less resource support. The path of a professional, one step at a time, step by step, is not a joke. After finishing speaking, everyone was waiting for Zheng Mu and the three of them to answer. Zheng Mu shrugged, mocking himself helplessly. I have no choice. Other universities treat me like a wild dog on the side of the road, and I don't want to put my hot face on someone's cold ass. Kai Xingkun shook his head. I have chosen, my old man is here, and I have the same attitude. Leng Bingyue didn't speak, but her eyes showed everything. Now, Gung Xinguo really wanted to cry but had no tears. Before, he was still talking to the leaders of the Department of Education about their achievements this year, but now the two people who had placed high hopes on them immediately rebelled. This made him only feel that the future was bleak. Su Qingguang didn't want to give up yet, so he called Kai Xingkuan's father immediately, after explaining the situation here. The rage and anxiety imagined on the phone did not appear. After a long silence, Father Kai's voice came from the microphone. Now that he has become a professional, it is his own choice how he will go in the future. Mr. Su, thank you for your concern. Then let him choose what the kid chooses. Saying that, the phone was hung up directly. And Kai Xingkuan immediately smiled, took the registration form from Gung Xingwa's hand, and handed it to the person in charge of Southwest Military Military University. 
On the other side, Leng Bingyue's head teacher was on the phone. Leng Qingya is an exaggeration. The focus turned out to be that Jing Mu was looked down upon by the people of Xingqing University and rejected by other universities. She is well known as a gentle beauty in Yintong City, but it is rare for her to swear on the phone. Those guys who scolded Xingqing University and Beiwu University are blind idiots. In the end, Leng Bingyue was not surprised at all, and got back her registration form. Gung Xinghua and the others left, and everyone could see that their backs were extremely gloomy. Seeing that Jing Mu and the others were so determined to join their Southwest Military Military University, the person in charge had a happy smile on his face. Okay, although you still need to go through the assessment to confirm whether you can join our school, but I am still here from the bottom of my heart, and welcome you to join in advance. I'm He Guan, a combat instructor of the Physical Combat Department of Southwest Military Military University, an A-level LV-67 bomb boxer. Hearing that the level of the person in charge was as high as 67, even Zheng Mu was slightly shocked. Does a person in charge of admissions in a small place like Zindui and Tongqing have this ability? It really deserves to be a first-class university. Even if it is about to face relegation, a lean camel is bigger than a horse. Handed the registration form to He Guang, and after the other party received it, he immediately asked Zheng Mu and the three of them to handle the identity registration procedures. Perhaps it was because Zheng Mu and the others were well aware of the situation here, and they still insisted on their determination to join, which won the approval of these soldiers. When going through the formalities, everyone greeted them with smiles, which was like heaven and earth compared to when they were at Xingqing University. Leng Binyue, A-Level Cold Wind Swordsman, LV-15 Chapter, 40 Leng Binyue, A-Level Cold Wind Swordsman, LV-15 when the staff responsible for leveling the information on the professional panel saw the level column opened by Ling Bingyue, he froze in place. On the side, the person in charge, He Guang, raised his head after hearing the number in his subordinate's mouth, and was slightly shocked by Ling Bingyue's professional panel. Upgrading to level 15 in a month, unless there is resource support from a big force behind it, otherwise, it will be really difficult. And how much power can this little cloud city have? It's nothing more than some professional guilds who accept the mission of accompanying the wilderness. After a brief shock, several people quickly registered Lang Bingyue's identity and handed a card to the other party. This thing is now the admission ticket you need to use when you take the entrance examination, and once you pass it, it will also become your identity card in Southwest Military Military University. Remember to keep it well. After explaining something, it was Kai Shinkuen's turn. When he saw that Kai Shinkuen was also steadily at level 15, the person in charge, He Guang, looked serious. Why do first-class universities conduct assessments, and there is a special requirement for the impact of LV-10? The purpose is to screen the quality of professionals. Upgrading to level 10 in a month can at least show that this person has certain training value, after all, if he doesn't have any fighting skills and personal abilities. Even if an army is arranged to take him to upgrade, Tian Dao is very harsh when distributing experience. But now, both Leng Bingyue and Kai Xinkuen are at level 15, so it doesn't matter whether they have received help from advanced professionals. The two of them were able to rise to LV 15 in one month in Tian Dao's experience distribution mechanism, at least because they had very excellent personal combat qualities. He Guang couldn't help but feel happy. There is no doubt that today is considered a treasure. How many people in the entire Cloud City have successfully awakened this year, and how many of them have high professional levels? However, now the two good seedlings have fallen into the hands of Southwest Military Military University. Just when He Guang was thinking about whether he should mention it to his superiors, talk about the situation of the two of them, and give him a little help in the assessment. When it was the turn of the staff in charge of grades for Zheng Mu, there was a sudden sound of inhalation. Level 18. He Guang turned his head and saw part of the panel information displayed by Zheng Mu. Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, Class A Mechanic. Level, LV 18020W. HP, 18001800. MP, 18001800. Computing power, 250400. Power, 40. 
Agility, 39. Spiritual Power, 42. Constitution, 41. Except for the level column, the rest of the attributes have no bright spots at all. There is no special occupation to buff attributes, and there is no equipment buff. A very standard panel for a naked level 18 professional. However, He Guang's brows were deeply wrinkled immediately. If I remember correctly, mechanics basically don't have any offensive skills, right? And the cooldown time of skills is terribly long. How did you manage to upgrade from LV1 to LV18 within a month? As He Guang said, he picked up a tablet and retrieved Zheng Mu's personal file through the Department of Education. Seeing that the other party is indeed a new professional with no flaws, he only awakened a month ago. The frown deepened. However, Zheng Mu just smiled lightly and spit out two words. Luck. Even if an SS-level professional with unlucky luck wants to rely on himself to upgrade to LV-18 within a month, it will take a lot of work. According to your information, you don't have any prominent background. However, He Guang couldn't think of it at all. It didn't take a month for the three of Zheng Mu to reach their current level. Counting the expenses on the road and rest on weekdays, it only took half a month. However, the three of Zheng Mu also knew that things should not be too shocking, and they just acquiesced to the other party's statement for a month. Seeing that Zheng Mu didn't intend to explain, He Guang took a deep look at Zheng Mu and the three of them, and then didn't investigate further. After all, the three of them just signed up to take the assessment of their Southwest Military Military University, and they are not from their university. Some things are not easy to get to the bottom of. However, at this moment, when He Guang and the others looked at their side again, when the enrollment entrance was empty, everyone's mood was completely different from before. Xingqin University didn't know it, Beiwu University didn't know it, and the admissions directors of these top-ranking universities around them would never think of it. Their unintentional move caused them to lose three newcomers who were most likely to be the most promising newcomers in Yintong City. Seeing that no one on his side wanted to come, He Guang simply stopped wasting the world. They directly moved a few chairs, and told Zheng Mu and the others about the next assessment. The assessment site is located in the Guten Desert in the southwestern part of the Dragon Kingdom. It is a competition to kill the number of monsters within the specified time, and the ranking is determined through the competition of points. The first-class colleges and universities will not announce their own admission scoreline in advance. After the assessment is over, the newcomers who meet the score requirements of the applicant school will be admitted. In addition, those who have obtained the top 10 points in the assessment will also be admitted in their respective examinations. Institutions, wait for additional incentives. Hearing He Guang's explanation, Zheng Mu frowned. Instructor He, will this assessment allow conflicts between people? Hearing this, He Guang nodded solemnly. That's what I'm going to say next. Not only will the assessment not oppose the conflict, but it can also directly eliminate the opponent by defeating the opponent and snatch the identity card in the opponent's hand, and inherit the points in the opponent's hand. In the examination field, except killing people, everything is allowed. Immediately, the three of Zheng Mu had already imagined the cruelty of the next competition. Can't kill. So what about the disabled? Cut off an arm, cut off a hand. Moreover, it seems that the other party did not say that team formation is not allowed, right? The three of them can team up, so what about the others? How many people will hold together in the largest team? In addition, the assessment site is located in a monster settlement where the monster level may reach LV-30 at the highest. Death, then, is obviously unavoidable. Chapter, 41 Seeing Jing Mu, the others were clearly aware of the cruelty of the next assessment. He Guang also nodded. Knowing what an assessment is in advance is safer than entering that Shura field with some unrealistic and naive ideas. I don't care, I just follow my boss anyway, wherever he goes, I will follow. Kai Shinkuan closed his eyes and raised his neck. He didn't want his brain to do any information processing work today. And his demeanor also attracted Zheng Mu's speechless eyes. This guy is quite reassuring about him. After He Guang heard Kai Shinkuan's words, he couldn't help but look at Zheng Mu curiously. However, after watching it for a long time, 
I couldn't see from the opponent's body that any leader should be strong, except for his higher level, only relying on his personal attributes. Even in some big cities, level 10 professionals can't compare. How did such a person make Ling Binghua and Kai Shinkuan, two talented people who are not fools, follow so firmly? Seeing He Guang sizing him up curiously, Cheng Mu smiled faintly. Instructor He, we all understand the assessment. Since the assessment time is half a month later, I want to ask a question that has nothing to do with the assessment. Since the Southwest Military Attaché University is a university with a military background, I would like to ask, if I want to apply to the military to purchase an obsolete armed command vehicle, can you help with the operation? He Guang was taken aback, as if he didn't understand Jing Mu's question. After Jing Mu said it again, he asked in surprise. What's the use of something like an armed command vehicle? Although that thing has tracks, it can't move because of the special situation in the bone-devouring desert. Seeing that the other party misunderstood what he meant, Jing Mu immediately shook his head. Instructor He, you said that it is not for assessment, so you just treat it as my personal purchase, can you ask me if there is any armed command vehicle for sale, even if it has been eliminated for more than 10 years, there is no problem. He Guang hesitated for a moment, then nodded after thinking about it. Let me ask for you. Now Blue Star is already the world of professionals, and the former kings of the battlefield have already been reduced to scrap metal and rotten iron. Soon after He Guang made several phone calls, he gave Zheng Mu a definite answer. Longjia 31 Armed Command Vehicle, which has been eliminated for 20 years, can be driven, but it can only be driven, and all the equipment inside has been dismantled. Do you want 200 million? 200 million. This price is definitely a deceitful price. If you can just open it, it is justified to erase the two zeros. However, Zheng Mu still nodded directly without hesitation. Yes. When can you give it to me the soonest? I was planning to talk to Zheng Mu, and I can talk to him in a few days to lower the price. But because of Zheng Mu's current courage without taking money, he was also speechless. After confirming that Jing Mu was not joking, he chatted with him directly. Hang up the phone and sit back again. The things can be shipped to Yuntong City for you in seven days at the latest, and then you can pay for the goods and deliver the goods. No, what's the use of you wanting this kind of scrap iron that I can't even hold with a single punch? Jing Mu just smiled without explaining. However, he pointed to the direction of the first class university admissions of Xingqing University and asked. Instructor He, these guys should have ridiculed you a lot recently, right? Hearing this question, He Guang's nostrils were filled with air, and his eyes became more fierce. His grandmas are a bunch of rotten people who only dare to play tricks and splash dirty water. Let them fight Lao Tzu head on, and no one dares to stand up. Seeing this, Zheng Mu's smile became more intense, and he moved closer slightly, saying something meaningfully. Then what if I said, this assessment, I can make them suffer a hundred times more than you. Instructor He, will Southwest Military Military University be able to keep us by then? When He Guang heard this, he glanced at Jing Mu in surprise, and then laughed. It turned out to be joking with him. Ha ha ha, if you can abide by the assessment rules and make those guys feel uncomfortable, let alone protect you, who dares to touch you? Although the situation of our Southwest Military Military University is a bit bad, our fists are sharp. Hearing this sentence, Zheng Mu nodded in satisfaction, and immediately got up and took Kai Xingkuan and the others away from here. The two made this decision today, and there must be a lot of things to explain to their family after they go back. On Zheng Mu's side, however, she also had her own affairs to attend to. He Guang didn't catch the deep meaning in what he said just now. What he said made these guys feel uncomfortable, not just referring to the heads of the schools in charge of recruiting students in Yuntong City, but the entire Dragon Kingdom. At that time, all the people in Longhua who have signed up for the first class university assessment will number at least 70 to 80 These are all B-level and above professionals, and some of them are S-level, and even SS-level professionals in the mouth of the Holy Purity University. I want to slap these arrogant and used to colleges hard, and charge some interest for the time being. Zheng Mu doesn't think he can do it with his current self. At night, looking at the starry night sky, Zheng Mu took a deep breath and let it out slowly. 
His eyes also became sharper at this moment. Mechanic tasteless things have existed for hundreds of years, and it is not an exaggeration to say that they are rooted in people's hearts. And if he wants to prove himself in the future, if he wants to truly stand on top of the world as a mechanic, he must face provocation and contempt like today. More and more. And for these sharp voices, the most favorable response is undoubtedly to make the other party kneel on the ground looking for teeth. He he he, thinking about it this way, I really feel a little excited. It has been half a month since returning from Carrion Town. In the past half a month, Jing Mu's expansion of his mechanical creations has never stopped. Stuck in my mind for three hours, I used Golden Hand, to convert the prepared purchased materials into materials used to assemble the T-800 and the liquor. In half a month, the number of T-800s under his command has reached 30, and there are also 25 liquors. However, this amount is obviously not enough to stop Jing Mu. Machine Nest, S Ammunition Depot Reserve, once refreshed, is enough for 120 T-800s to use it all day long. The number of my current subordinates is still a long way from this limit. Hey, it's a pity that the materials are too rare, and the trading center doesn't have much in stock. I really want to see the resources of Dechenki quickly. I don't know if the trading center there will even sell materials above the Red Brave level. Chapter, 42 Half a month before the start of the assessment. Zheng Mu could clearly feel that the newcomers around him were obviously anxious. During this period of time, the flow of people to the city gate to the wilderness has increased a lot. And at the active request of Kai Xinkuan and Ling Bingyue, he once again drove Optimus Prime towards the wilderness. However, now that he has more than 50 mechanical creatures under his command, he has truly realized the wilderness lying flat. Night Beast Forest A monster area that was originally in Jing Mu's upgrade plan. The monster level is almost at LV10, LV25. There are many kinds of monsters, and sometimes a jungle saber-toothed tiger of level 20 or above pops out of nowhere. However, Jing Mu is lying on the branch of a dense tree, looking up at the mottled green sky above his head in this area where others need to be cautious. On the panel, a series of messages flashed across. You killed the jungle saber-toothed tiger LV21, and got 187 experience points. You kill green slime LV14, get 13 experience points, green excellent material slime softener. You killed the flower demon LV24, you got 336 experience points, blue elite material flower demon remains. You kill. Amidst the sound of wild beasts running, a liquor handed Jing Mu the light ball that fell during hunting, turned around and ran out again. Looking at the two light clusters in his hand, Zheng Mu thought of the few things left in his backpack. In the spare time, my mind suddenly became active. Golden hand, it was used on the flower demon remains without hesitation. In a burst of light, a body that was no doubt a human woman appeared in front of him. Service robot main body, green excellent grade material work of mechanic Zheng Mu, does not have the performance of combat related work, but it can be used for daily life service, and is one of the main components of service robots. However, this information is not the point. The point is that this robot is under the intentional control of Zheng Mu, and its appearance is absolutely 100% restored to a character in his previous life. A woman known as Jerusalem in District 3D. Tifa Lockhart. Afterwards, Zheng Mu took out from his backpack again, something he transformed from boredom some time ago. Using a monster core called Wandering Soul in Carrion Town, the blue elite level intelligent control core female was transformed. And some white common level imitation human biological tissue system transformed from slime remains. The three things are combined and synthesized using the T-800 blueprint. Accompanied by a burst of mixed light appeared in front of Zheng Mu, these components were successively absorbed together in a light cluster. A voice sounded in my mind. Inconsistent with the established drawings, the assembly check is being reset. Assembling according to an unknown path, the feasibility is 82%, pay attention to the risk of damage. The main body of the service robot, loaded. Reparable silicon-based structure, loaded. Intelligent control core Tifa Lockhart, loaded. Imitation human biological tissue system, loaded. 
Zheng Mu frowned slightly. Sure enough, without blueprints, there is a risk of failure to independently assemble mechanical creations. He couldn't help but think of the big guy he planned to build, but there was no blueprint for that. Once a mistake occurs, the combination fails, and the precious degree of many of the materials is quite high. If it really fails, then he will feel distressed. System, without complete blueprints, how can we maximize the success rate of assembling new mechanical creations? Ding, the host can be targeted, according to the final result in his mind, prepare the transformed mechanical components as perfect as possible, and the success rate can be increased to 90%. Zheng Mu just nodded, and at this moment, the light in front of him dissipated. A delicate woman with only a three-point dress appeared in front of Zheng Mu. The skin is as fair as suet jade, which can be broken by blowing. The face is exquisite like an angel, which is unbearable to be profaned. The drawing of the unknown path has been assembled and is being recorded for you. Congratulations to you for obtaining the Green Excellent Blueprint 3D Area Handmaiden. Zheng Mu. Zheng Mu. System, get out of here, you can actually read my thoughts. I didn't even say it, how did you know I wanted to name it? Zheng Mu was ashamed and roared in his heart with embarrassment. However, the system ignored him again. Instead, it was Tifa who was charming and charming in front of her, asking softly. Master, what can Tifa do for you? Gudong. For this Jerusalem, Zheng Mu said that he would really lose his concentration. He hurriedly asked the other party to hide first, while he jumped off the branch. According to the guidance of his terminator, he quickly found Ling Bingyue and the others who had just killed a mutated wild boar. Well, Bingyue, did you bring an extra change of clothes, lend me a set? Lang Bingyue's puzzled gaze instantly became blank, as if wondering whether the information transmitted by her brain was wrong. Kai Shinkuan, who was at the side, swallowed even more, and immediately gave a thumbs up to Zheng Mu's eyes. Express your unwavering stance. He already had to admire him, asking for clothes from a girl, and the girl was at Lang Bingyue's level. To be honest, People who have no guts really dare not say this. What do you want my clothes for? Lang Bingyue held a knife in his hand, and when he looked at Jing Mu, his pupils shrank in an instant as if thinking of something. You wouldn't be. No. Jing Mu immediately understood what the other party was thinking, and interrupted without hesitation. After hesitating for a long time, he still said in embarrassment. Well, I created another mechanical creation, but this time, something is different. Chapter, 43 This is the mechanical creation in your mouth. On the canopy where Zheng Mu stayed before, the dense branches and leaves cover it up. However, when Ling Binyue saw the new work in Zheng Mu's mouth, he was ashamed, doubtful, and with some sour questioning voices, which came from the canopy. Below, Kai Shinkuan has already been full of curiosity and wants to take a look at the new work that Zheng Mu is talking about. What kind of new work actually needs to use Lang Daxiao's beautiful clothes? What kind of new work actually makes Lang Daxiao's voice sound a little strange? However, Zheng Mu sternly told him that it was worthwhile to come up, so he could only scratch his head and wait in discomfort below. Master, may I ask who you are? Tifa's voice came, and at this moment the other party was still blinking big eyes, looking very puzzled. Exactly like a real living person. Seeing this scene, Lang Bingyue blushed even more, while she was ashamed and indignant, she looked at Tifa in shock at the same time. You can talk. As if thinking of something, he grabbed Tifa's arm with one hand. The real smooth feel and the warm touch made Lang Bingyue turn his head to look at Jing Mu's eyes again, which became very strange. What are you what are you going to do with her? And. Lang Bingyue felt that what she said next was extremely ashamed, but she had to ask again. Why do you want her to wear my clothes again? Zheng Mu looked at Ling Bingyue, who was blushing and had a pretty face, not knowing what the other party meant, so he waved his hands hastily. Well, don't think too much about it, I brought such a set of clothes when I came out, and I can't let her wear the clothes of that boy Ji Kuan, what does it look like, it can only be you. Suspicious eyes sized Zheng Mu up. What about the purpose? Why do you want to build such a mechanical creation, not only with intelligence, but also with the same bionics as human beings? 
you wouldn't have made it specially for that kind of thing. For a girl like Leng Bingyue to be able to talk to this extent, it is obvious that the doubts in her heart can no longer be suppressed. However, how could Jin Mu admit it? At this time, let alone swearing to be struck by lightning, even if he swears with his third leg, he must not expose his other side to the other party. No. Don't think too much about it. I will never do that kind of thing. As for why she appeared, the inspiration came. It's purely coincidental. Looking at Jing Mu, who was right in his words, Leng Bingyue still had some doubts in her heart, but in the end she chose to trust the other party. Even she didn't notice that she would have such a big reaction to Tifa's appearance today. Take out a set of your own clothes, which is a shirt and jeans. Seeing Tifa elegantly dressed there, the scent of flowers exuding from her body in the completely invisible bionic structure, Leng Bingyue had to be shocked by Zheng Mu's ability at this moment. If she hadn't been told by the other party that it was a mechanical creation, I'm afraid Tifa would not have discovered the other party's true identity even if she walked past her. They will only treat each other as a real person. Master, the clothes are a bit small. Tifa's soft voice came, but she saw that the other party lowered his head, trying hard to tighten the buttons in front of him. Zheng Mu turned his head and looked to the side, but he happened to meet Leng Bingyue's eyes that looked like ice blades. He hurriedly waved his hands, turned his head and touched his nose to hide his embarrassment. Well, bear with it, wait until you return to the city. Boom! Snapped. Before Zheng Mu finished speaking, a button suddenly jumped out of Tifa's chest and hit Ling Bingyue on the forehead directly in front of him. Seeing this scene, Zheng Mu felt a chill rising from the soles of his feet, but Tifa in front of him was dying at the moment, and immediately bowed down to apologize to Ling Bingyue. I'm very sorry, I didn't mean to, please forgive me. The weight of this apology is undoubtedly huge, big enough to dangle in front of Ling Bingyue. Crack. Shameless. On the way back to the city, the atmosphere in the carriage was undoubtedly silent again. Zheng Mu sat silently in the driving seat, looking ahead. Leng Bingyue sat in the co-pilot, looking out the window. But Kai Xinkuan was sitting in the back row, his eyes couldn't help but drift towards Tifa's body beside him. When he found out that the super beauty in front of him, with a gorgeous face and a wow figure, was actually a mechanical creation made by Zheng Mu, Kai Xinkuan looked at Zheng Mu with eyes that had changed from the boss. Became a god. Thinking that the T-800 under Zheng Mu's command can change from the original one, to two, to three, to dozens now. Then it is obviously impossible to create only one female mechanical creation in front of me. A hen boss is not, foster father, I. When the words came to his lips, he happened to meet Leng Bingyue who had turned his head, and held back abruptly. When returning home, Leng Bingyue glanced at Zheng Mu and Tifa who got out of the car at the moment, gave each other a warning look, and left without looking back. On the other side, seeing Leng Bingyue leave, Kai Xinkuan's expression management suddenly became wild. Boss, boss, listen to me, we grew up together, we grew up together, some brothers' families may not be able to have one, the two of us did it. Being hugged by this guy like a rogue, Zheng Mu also looked helpless. Taking a careful look at the direction Leng Bingyue left, he hesitated again and again. I could build you one, but... Zheng Mu looked at the other party and said word by word, if someone finds out that you are doing that kind of thing, you go jump off the building yourself and prove your innocence to me. Kai Xinkuan nodded without hesitation. If you jump off a building, you can just jump off the building. Now he can't fall from the height of five or six floors. That night, Zheng Mu went shopping alone in a women's clothing store in the commercial street of Yuntong City, with large and small bags full of storage backpacks. That night, Zheng Mu frantically swept through several pieces of materials in the Yuntong City Monster Material Trading Center, spending more than 30 million crazily. This night, Kai Xinkuan took out the videotapes that he had treasured since childhood. Chapter 44 The Next Few Days the three of Zheng Mu are still dating, going out to the wilderness to upgrade their level. And Zheng Mu was very sensible and didn't let Tifa appear in front of Ling Bingyue again. In his words, he just helped him clean the room and tidy up at home. Ling Bingyue accepted this statement, and the look in Zheng Mu's eyes became softer from the original indifference. 
I don't know if the appearance of Tifa made the other party feel a sense of crisis. Both Xing Mu himself and Kai Xingkuan, who was watching the show, have noticed that Ling Bingyue's attitude towards Xing Mu has changed. At least it was no longer so cold compared to before. Although there are few smiles, Xing Mu can really see some of them. You killed the ghost face butterfly LV21, you got 191 experience points. You kill green slime LV16, get 61 experience points. You kill the flower horn deer LV18, get 100 experience points. You killed. A series of kill messages floated across the panel, and suddenly there was a surge of energy. Zheng Mu felt that his body was getting stronger. You have upgraded, the current level is LV19. You have new skills to learn. Although Kai Xingkuan was happy to see Zheng Mu's level improved, he was not surprised. Zheng Mu should have been upgraded a long time ago. During this time, even he and Leng Binyue have been promoted to LV16. With so many mechanical creations under Zheng Mu looking for monsters to kill in the jungle, they should have been upgraded a long time ago. Boss, how are you doing with that thing? When Kai Xingkuan asked this question, his voice was very low. Even though Leng Binyue was on the other side, 30 or 40 meters away from them, he seemed afraid that the other party would hear him. The two of them looked in Leng Binyue's direction like spies. Seeing that the other party didn't pay attention to this side, Xing Mu nodded. Go to my place to pick it up tonight, but the matter is settled, I will not open the authority to be probed, that is to say, if anyone knows that I made that thing, it will definitely be your kid who said it. Hearing this, Kai Xingkuan put his palms together hurriedly, with a look of gratitude. As for Xing Mu, he was very indifferent to his good deeds of helping Kai Xingkuan to fulfill his childhood regrets. Friend. What's more, what Kai Xingkuan said was right, the two grew up as brothers. We still need to help with this. Kai Xingkuan suppressed the ecstasy in his heart, pretending to be calm and walked towards the other side, and Zheng Mu finally clicked on his skill tree column. At this moment, the two skills are already shining, showing that they can be learned. Biological Scanning LV1, after using it, you can scan the target creature whose own level is reduced by 10, and there is a 30% chance to obtain the blueprint of the mechanical creation related to the creature. Cooling Time, 12 hours. Computing Power Occupation, 20-50% discount for Computing Power Enhancement. Nanomechanical Wave LV1, it can transform white common grade materials in batches, and convert them into mechanical components of the corresponding level at one time. It can transform no more than 100 targets each time. Cooling time, 1 day. Computing power occupation, 20-50% discount for computing power enhancement. Hiss. The two new skill information made Zheng Mu gasp in surprise. They are all skills used to make mechanical creations. The former is used to make blueprints, while the latter directly solves the problem of low-level blueprint materials. You know, Zheng Mu needs to wait another three hours every time he transforms a mechanical material before unlocking the more advanced version of Golden Hand. And to make a blue elite-level mechanical creation, at least three to four of these materials are needed. It is equivalent to that even if Zheng Mu gets the time right, he can only assemble at most two complete mechanical creations in one day. If this situation is placed on a white common level mechanical creation, it is obviously very wasteful. However, nano mechanical wave, perfectly solves this problem. Without the slightest hesitation, Zheng Mu directly chose to study. Having just learned a new skill, Zheng Mu couldn't wait to try it out immediately. The target of the scan needs to be 10 levels lower than me, that is to say, I can only scan monsters below level 9 at the moment. Thinking of this, Zheng Mu's eyes immediately began to look around. Those already aggressive monsters in the night beast forest must be dead. The lowest level here is over level 10. So. Zheng Mu raised his head slightly, and in the next moment, under the influence of Blue Star's Heavenly Dao rules, small animals with levels appeared in front of him. Butterfly LV1, Mosquito LV1, Snake LV3 Eagle LV9. Zheng Mu's eyes lit up, and he stood up instantly from the branch of the tree. Using the ghost shadow step, he jumped a few times as if frightened by a bird, and he had reached the top of the tree. Standing on a small branch, it is steady. 
looking at the flying eagle flying above the sky, the opponent is as fast as lightning, and at this moment is chasing a wild bird that has been unknown. Without hesitation, Zheng Mu directly used biological scanning. A blue light that only he could see swept across Fei Ying's body. A reminder is to swipe across his panel. Bioscan LV-1, launch successfully, scan target LV-9 flying eagle. Obtain the white common blueprint patrol eagle. Seeing this new drawing, Zheng Mu's eyes lit up. The materials needed for white common level mechanical creations are also very simple. Looking at the birds in the sky, Zheng Mu suddenly took out the holy land demon wolf, that he hadn't used for a long time. The next moment, there was a burst of intensive gunfire. Zheng Mu's single-digit experience points were drawn across the panel to get a reminder. At the same time, a bunch of liquors were already heading towards the place where the bird's carcass fell. After a while, a whole hundred white common material light clusters appeared in front of Zheng Mu. White common grade material bird eye, white common grade material bird carcass. Without hesitation, Zheng Mu released the nanomechanical wave, violently at the materials on the ground in front of him. After a circle of strange energy, the corpses on the ground were transformed into small mechanical components. And with Zheng Mu, all the assembly was completed. A total of 50 flying eagles reflecting a slight metallic color covered the forest. Name, Patrol Eagle. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Zheng Mu. Grade, White Common. Durability, 50-50. Attack Power, 4 to 10. Defense Power, 5. Skill 1, Eagle Eye, which can accurately detect the target below at an altitude of more than 800 meters. Skill 2, Bird's Nest, link the surrounding patrol eagles, build a high-altitude reconnaissance network, and give feedback on real-time coordinate information. Chapter, 45. Fuck, boss, what kind of amazing thing have you come up with? Such a big movement immediately attracted the attention of Kai Shinkuen who was killing monsters and upgrading not far away. When you see fifty lifelike patrol eagles that fly into the sky in an instant. Leng Bingyue frowned as she looked at the fifty mechanical creations that suddenly appeared. Did you learn any new skills? Zheng Mu nodded, the pairing of biological scanning, and nanomechanical wave, is simply a magical existence, and seeing that the two of them are very curious about the role of the patrol eagle. Zheng Mu didn't mean to show off, so he called AT-800 directly. With a bright blue light emitting from each other's eyes, a small 3D scanning model like a sand table appeared in front of the three of them. This, this is the night beast forest we are in now. Kai Shinkuen recognized what the sand table represented at a glance. However, it was obviously too early to be surprised at this moment. After Zheng Mu smiled mysteriously, the light flowed. Dots of red dots appeared one after another on the blue sand table. The screen zoomed in, and it turned out to be moving monsters one by one, as if seen by thermal imaging, and they were still freely moving in the night beast forest at this moment. The patrol eagle's level is not high, it's just a white common level mechanical creation, and it doesn't have any real combat power, but it is a sharp weapon in reconnaissance. Zheng Mu smiled slightly, the cost is low, the coverage is wide, and the most important thing is the detected information can be directly shared with all the mechanical creations under my command. As he said that, another change appeared on the light curtain. A series of yellow figures, following those red monster figures, appeared one after another on it. It is the T-800 and liquors under Zheng Mu's command. And just after Zheng Mu's mechanical creations were connected to the detected information, the T-800 headed by the Terminator and the Lickers headed by Black Claw immediately made the most reasonable battle deployment. After leaving a part of the force, the defensive post established around the core of Zheng Mu. They attacked the nearby monsters with precision. On Zheng Mu's panel, the scene that had been calmed down by the upgrade just now appeared again with a barrage of killing bullets. Zheng Mu is used to this. Leng Bingyue and the two looked at the proud Zheng Mu in shock, and then seemed to think of something. It seems that you are going to make a big move during the assessment. Are you going to target those newcomers from Xingqing University? Hearing this, Zheng Mu didn't shake his head in denial, but he didn't nod either. Now, Leng Bingyue's eyes when looking at Zheng Mu changed, and the eyes were full of brilliance. 
On the other hand, Kai Shinkuan was not interested in who Jing Mu was going to target. Who is Jing Mu? That's the adoptive father who arranged for him a beautiful maid. If the adoptive father said he wanted to hit someone, then Kai Shinkuan, a dutiful son and grandson, would immediately aim his gun at someone's head without hesitation, and serve him with a wave of golden gun shooter combos. While chatting on their side, a mobile phone rang suddenly. Jing Mu's eyes lit up when he saw the caller ID. Hey, instructor he, but something has arrived. On the other end of the phone, he Guang laughed when he heard Jing Mu's obviously impatient tone. Indeed, it has already arrived at the military camp in Yuntong City, but what's the use of you boy wanting that kind of old stuff that has been eliminated for decades? I can make an agreement with you. My face can only help you get things out. If you are not satisfied with the goods, I can't help you. Hearing this, Zheng Mu would say no words of refusal. Isn't it just obsolescence and equipment aging? As long as your mechanics skills are strong enough, plus God's blessing. Once things are done by him, he will be the next Optimus Prime. Thinking of this, Zheng Mu no longer wanted to waste time in the wilderness, and immediately brought Ling Binyue and the others back to Yuntong City. Outside the military camp in Yuntong City. After receiving the news, He Guang walked out immediately, followed by an imposing officer in military uniform. This is the classmate Jing Mu that Lao He talked about, right? If it weren't for Lao He's various guarantees, plus what you want is really nothing, otherwise I really wouldn't dare to be the master. Hearing what the other party said, Jing Mu smiled and shook hands, but he didn't believe a word. Things that have been eliminated for decades, if there is no warehouse that I think is still in the abandoned factory, Curry eats ashes and takes up space. Soon, under the leadership of He Guang, the three of them passed through the guard posts one after another, and saw that Jing Mu spent 200 million to buy scrap copper and rotten iron. No, boss, you wouldn't say that you spent 200 million to buy such a thing, would you? It's not like you're making money so fast. Kai Shinkuan looked at the rusty chariot in front of him, and before entering its interior, he could already feel a sense of history rushing towards his face. The eyeballs are about to pop out. On the other hand, the officer from before had a more or less flushed face. Well, the outside is a bit old. Considering Lao He's relationship, I specially asked someone to repair some of the inside before I shipped it, and some of the components that were originally dismantled were also installed. However, before he could finish speaking, Lang Binyue at the side made up the knife directly. Is it the devices that were dismantled twenty years ago? Ignoring the anxiety of the two, Cheng Mu looked happy after stroking the armored command vehicle. The system has already told him that the thing in front of him can be like the Hualong FAW-389 truck that he had back then. As the main body of the mechanical assembly. Without the slightest hesitation, Zheng Mu directly transferred the money on the spot. General, can you help me get this thing delivered to this address? Seeing Zheng Mu paying so happily, the officer finally felt somewhat embarrassed. Hearing this request, he nodded immediately. Student Zheng Mu, please don't call me a general. What kind of general am I? In this way, my name is Li Ping, and I also have a position as an instructor in Southwest Military Military University. Just like Lao He, you can call me Instructor Li. Hearing this, Zheng Mu didn't refuse either. Looking at the facilities in the surrounding barracks, as well as some faintly visible tanks. As he said that, he suddenly felt that the system made him choose Southwest Military Military University, which seemed to be much better than choosing Xingqin University. If the future is not guaranteed, you can still get some good things from the military. Chapter 46 the address Xing Mu gave Li Ping was exactly the address of the all-steel structure villa that he had asked the Kai family to build for him. Father Kai found out that Xing Mu, a junior he was extremely optimistic about, had received cold reception at both Xingqin University and Beiwu University, and he obviously wanted to help him. Although I don't know what this all-steel structure villa is used for, but there is obviously no harm in completing it earlier. And just two days before He Guang sent the armored command vehicle to Yuntong City. It's already finished here. Covered by a large tarpaulin, Zheng Mu didn't attract anyone's attention when he appeared here at night. 
At this moment, the main body of an all-steel structure villa full of post-war style without any trace of decoration stands here quietly. On the other side, there was the Dragon Armor 31 armed command vehicle parked quietly. In the sky outside the villa, patrol eagles have already flown into the sky, and Zheng Mu asked the Terminator to guard around the construction site with all the T-800s. He took out items one by one from the storage backpack behind him. Except for the mechanical components converted from purple rare grade materials that I bought at the trading center. There are also some electrical appliances and components that he and Kai Shinkuan vigorously purchased some time ago. Five converted purple rare tier components. They are weapon system necrosis laser cannon, transformed from blue flame scorpion king tail. Detection system dome, converted from beautiful dragon skin. Firepower system torrent, converted from explosive bug egg. Logistics system doomsday expert, transformed from slime leader remains. And finally, use the power system magnetoelectric matrix, converted from thunderstorm fish core. The materials for these monsters are all monsters that suddenly appeared around Yuntong City in recent years, were killed by powerful professionals in Yuntong City or the surrounding area, and sold to the trading center. However, in this small cloud city, there are very few life professionals who can handle these materials. I'm afraid, if Zheng Mu hadn't bought it here, it would have been shipped to trading centers in other big cities for sale soon. In addition to these, the nano self-healing system, transformed from the purple rare material source of distortion, obtained some time ago is also one of the mechanical components Zheng Mu prepared this time. Afterwards, Zheng Mu took out the mechanical nest, and saw a pile of materials and components piled up in front of him. Zheng Mu took a deep breath and finally gave an order to the system in his mind. Calculate for me, using the drawings of Transformers Optimus Prime, the success rate of combining these mechanical components at present. Calculating, 90% feasibility. Hearing this, Zheng Mu gritted his teeth, this probability is already the highest probability that can be raised without a complete matching blueprint. That one-tenth failure rate made Zheng Mu helpless. If you expect the system to release blueprints obtained from mission rewards to strengthen yourself, you will have to wait until the year of the monkey. If I want to have more mechanical creations in the future, I still need to go through a mechanical blueprint and add other components like branches and leaves to explore and assemble. Hesitation is not in his character, he gritted his teeth. Zheng Mu ordered immediately. Assemble. The next moment, in the completely covered construction site, an invisible force field began to rotate. There was also a voice in Zheng Mu's mind. Inconsistent with the established drawings, the assembly check is being reset. Assembling according to an unknown path, 90% feasible, be aware of the risk of damage. The main body of the all-steel structure villa has been loaded. Longjia 31 Armored Command Vehicle, loaded. Machines Nest, loaded. Weapon System Necrotic Laser Cannon, loaded. Investigation System Dome, loaded. Firepower System Torrent, loaded. Logistics System Doomsday Expert, loaded. Power System Magnetoelectric Matrix, loaded. Nano Self-Healing System, loaded. Zheng Mu held his breath nervously, the light cluster in front of him was constantly twisting, and the notification sound in his mind that the loading of each item was completed made him dare not relax in the slightest. With so many mechanical components, as long as one is fully loaded, it will all be lost. It doesn't matter if other things are destroyed. But machine nest, that would definitely make him feel so distressed that he couldn't breathe. However, in his construction plan, some functions would be difficult to maintain without the addition of machine nest. And just when Zheng Mu couldn't help but think wildly. Another voice sounded. Fire seed source body energy core, loaded. Yes. Yes. Zheng Mu jumped up excitedly, waving his fists on the spot irresistibly. But in front of him, the villa disappeared, all kinds of materials worth hundreds of millions also disappeared, and a lot of electrical appliances he purchased also disappeared. Only one armored command vehicle remained. However, this armored command vehicle is no longer the previous Longjia 31 armored command vehicle. It is a super tank with a height of more than 15 meters, and the height of the tracks and tires alone exceeds the original Dragon Armor 31. 
The chariot is green, with a Transformers logo printed on it, but it is not the Autobot logo of Optimus Prime, but the Decepticons. The appearance of the chariot has gone beyond the definition of a chariot. It is completely a four or five story building that can be built one by one. Seeing the existence in front of him, Jing Mu's eyes became even hotter. That's right, it's like this, ha ha ha, I want to see if some SS level professional can walk past my base. In the night, Jing Mu's laughter was very clear in this construction site. Free up all the space in the storage backpack, it is enough to fit the big guy in front of you. The next day. Just as Father Kai sent his son to the pickup bus for the Southwest Military Military University examination, the next moment the phone rang suddenly. As soon as he picked it up, the hurried voices of his subordinates came. Boss. Something is wrong with the boss. It's gone. The villa we built for Mr. Zheng. It's gone. Father Kai was stunned. The villa is gone. What do you mean? Chapter, 47 Outside Yintong City, a convoy full of newcomers from Yintong City set off slowly under the watchful eyes of their parents. In the convoy, inside the car of the Southwest Military Attaché University. In the huge bus, apart from the driver and He Guang and other recruiting staff, there were only Zheng Mu and the others. That's right, Southwest Military Attaché University only recruited three of them in Yintong City this year. Sitting in the front row, He Guang looked at the other college vehicles filled with new professionals, his eyes full of aggrieved and unwillingness. However, after a while, this unwillingness turned into a deep sigh due to various reasons. Instructor He, sighing like this makes me feel insulted. On the side, Kai Shinkuan was speechless. He Guang turned his head, glanced at the three of them, but shook his head helplessly. To be honest, if it weren't for the special circumstances of you guys, if you signed up for our Southwest Military Officers Assessment at the beginning, I would immediately advise you to choose another university really. Looking at He Guang's expressionless expression, Zheng Mu frowned slightly. Instructor He, how bad is the situation at the Southwest Military Military University now? Is it certain that you will be demoted? He Guang nodded, then shook his head again. Although the relegation has not been confirmed yet, it is almost the same. Everything depends on this year's Dragon Country Professional Contest. If no one can make it into the top 10 rookies in the first round, then relegation is inevitable. It's a pity. He Guang turned his head and looked at the three of them bitterly. Words have spread that the number and quality of the new recruits our school has recruited this year will probably be greatly reduced. Under such circumstances, what do you think we can compete with those guys from Xingqing University? Now, even Kai Xinkuan and Ling Bingyue frowned. Judging from the fact that only three of them were recruited in Yuntong City, the Southwest Military Military University this year may be really in danger. Has the school never thought about lowering the assessment threshold? Just after Ling Bingyue finished speaking, He Guang and the admission staff around him shook their heads again and again, and their unwillingness turned into arrogance in an instant. Although the situation of our Southwest Military Military University has not been good in recent years, our foundation is a stable first-class university. Why should we lower the threshold? Isn't it that we have polluted our identity? Now, Kai Shinkuan and Ling Bingyue stopped talking. The truth is this, but aren't you about to drop out of a first-class university soon? If you take the initiative to lower the threshold, the number of newcomers recruited today will definitely not be less than those of the previous universities. At most, it is lacking in quality. The atmosphere in the car suddenly became silent. However, Zheng Mu, who was sitting by the window, thought about it secretly. If this is the case, Southwest Military Attaché University does not mean that there is no chance of salvation. There is still a whole year to go before the next Dragon Country professional competition. One year is enough for him to do many things. Whether it is to create more and more powerful mechanical creations, or to upgrade to unlock more skills and improve your own strength. All are promising. The assessment site is in the Bone Swallowing Desert, located in the northwest of the Dragon Kingdom. As for Zheng Mu and the others, they needed to go to the nearby big city, and then take the teleportation array there to go to the city near the bone swallowing desert. Yuanping City, as the nearest large city with a teleportation node in Yuntong City. 
When Jing Mu and the others arrived, they were stunned by the scene at the teleportation square. We are from Tianyao City, are you all going to take the Beiwu University assessment? Yeah, there are a lot of B-level professionals in Tianyao City this year, which is too strong. Hey, what is this? Before I was a B-level, I thought it was pretty good. It wasn't until I came here that I realized that I used to say that I am a frog in a well. Look over there, among those people in Beiyu City, the one with white hair. S-level professional. Hiss. S-level. How many people do we have here, and there are already S-level professionals? What about the entire Black Gold County? What about the whole country? Listening to the noisy discussion, Zheng Mu and the others also looked towards the focus of the discussion. A young man with white hair is carrying an ancient sword on his back at this moment, and he is wearing a green shirt dressed in ancient clothes. Facing the discussions around him, he didn't respond in the slightest. And looking at the team standing on the other side, it is one of the people who will participate in the assessment of Xingqing University. S-level occupation. I'm looking forward to it. Zheng Mu tugged at the slime backpack behind him, the strong fighting spirit in his eyes flashed away, and the next moment he followed He Guang and others, walking towards the other side. And what he didn't notice was. Just when he turned to leave, the white-haired young man who hadn't reacted suddenly raised his head, frowning and glanced at his back. Is it my illusion? The young man murmured, he clearly felt a sharp aura coming from that direction, which brought him a strong sense of crisis. However, when he turned his head to look, the aura disappeared. On the side, several people around the young man noticed the other's gaze. He glanced over there, then sneered. Ha ha ha, student Gu Ming, don't look at it, there are people from the Southwest Military Military University over there. I always thought that no one would foolishly choose the current Southwest Military Military Officer. I didn't expect. There was a pity tisk tisk sound from this population, and he had not yet entered a first-class university, but he had already begun to unconsciously look at the current Southwest Military Military University with his nostrils. After hearing the other party's words, the young swordsman named Gu Ming also slowly looked back. Naturally, he had heard about the Southwest Military Military University, and in his opinion, the kind of person who could give him a sense of danger as an S-level wine swordsman should not choose the doomed Southwest Military Military University. After all, who would joke about their own future? The other side. When Zheng Mu and the others followed He Guang into the core of the square where the teleportation formation was located, quite a few people were already standing in front of the transmission formation. Among them, the person in charge of admissions at Yuntangcheng, Xingqing University, who rejected Zheng Mu, was on the list. Old He, you have recruited only a few people in the surrounding cities of Yuanping City this year, right? Isn't this requirement a bit too high? He Guang's face darkened instantly, and he looked back. People from several cities gathered together, and now there are at least 200 people in other universities for reference. On the other hand, Southwest Military Affairs University, counting Zheng Mu and the others, there are less than 10 of them. On the side, the admissions directors of several universities burst into laughter. One person even looked worried. Oh, Southwest Military Military University is a first-class university, and the assessment conditions are quite harsh. These kittens, three or two, shouldn't all be eliminated at once. That's going to be difficult. Chapter, 48 Oh, Southwest Military Military University is a first-class university, and the assessment conditions are quite harsh. These kittens, three or two, shouldn't all be eliminated at once. That's going to be difficult. The obvious taunting words fell in the ears of an iron-blooded man like He Guan. In an instant, their anger was ignited. However, just when they were about to raise their fists and start doing it, a cold snort suddenly came. Humph. Southwest Military Military University is looking for a little less people, but you are as happy as if your mother-in-law finally stopped a benefactor. You have forgotten what kind of shabby family you settled in back then, right? Everyone looked in the direction of the person coming, and He Guang and the others stood up straight in an instant. General Qin. Zheng Mu and the others looked curiously at this man who was dressed in black but was called a general by He Guang and the others. It seemed that he had really met a big shot. 
In the face of General Qin's reprimand, the other university admissions directors who had been booing suddenly died down. All of them lowered their heads and scattered like birds and beasts. General, why are you here in person? He Guang asked carefully, but General Qin's eyes did not turn up after seeing that there were only less than ten people behind him. I didn't expect the situation here to be so bad. Hearing this, He Guang and the others were startled, and General Qin sighed when they saw this. I came here specially from Guqin County. From their entire county this year, only 71 people have applied for our Southwest military officer. Speaking of this, even he, who was extremely strong just now, sighed in front of Zheng Mu and the others. Now it seems that the situation in Heijin County is not much better. He Guang and the others turned pale. This year, they were mentally prepared for the difficulty in enrolling students at the Southwest Military Military University when they set off. However, it never occurred to him that a county could not even recruit a hundred people. After the entire Dragon Kingdom, they were able to recruit two zero zero people, thank God. And two zero zero people for a first-class university like Xingqin University, only in Heijin County, this number is already included in the registration reference. The few people behind Zheng Mu who heard about the situation at the Southwest Military Military University, which turned out to be so bad, all looked at each other, with a little regret in their eyes. Unfortunately, the registration information for registration has been bound. Either they will be admitted to the Southwest Military Attaché University, which is about to face relegation, with first-class grades. Or, just be eliminated directly, and lose the chance to enter the university from then on, like those D-level professionals, find a guild and become a casual cultivator in the field. Just when everyone was feeling overwhelmed for a while, the sound that the teleportation array could be used soon came from the other side. Since Zheng Mu and the others temporarily came to the big man, General Qin, everyone became the first batch of people to enter the teleportation formation. With a burst of dazzling white light occupying the line of sight. In the midst of a whirlwind, Zheng Mu could only feel a soft delicate body in his arms with a fresh fragrance. When he recovered, he saw Ling Bingyue anxiously pushing him away. The latter blushed and turned his head to the side. Fuck, boss, there are so many people. Kai Xingkuan's exclamation came, and Zheng Mu looked around. The sky is yellow and orange, the air is dry, and the sun is hot. Most importantly, Zheng Mu can feel the smell of wind and sand in the air even after taking a breath. Your identity cards will show the location of your temporary resting place, go there by yourself. He Guang came over at this time and looked at Zheng Mu and the others. After finishing speaking, he quickly rushed in one direction. Yellow Sand City, as its name suggests, was built on the periphery of the bone-swallowing desert. The environment is harsh, and there are troops stationed all year round. The huge fortress-like city had an obvious military atmosphere. After asking a few patrolling soldiers, Zheng Mu and others finally found their own residence. Very simple, like a vacant barracks. Boss, the situation of Southwest Military Military University this year seems to be more terrifying than we imagined. Look at the expression of General Qin before. Maybe the school will be downgraded before the Dragon Country Professional Competition. Kai Xingkuan said worriedly, Zheng Mu also nodded with frowning. On the side, Leng Bingyue also expressed his thoughts. I feel that several other first-class universities are obviously uniting to suppress the Southwest Military Military University. Otherwise, the relegation has not been confirmed yet, but this matter has spread throughout the country, and everyone knows about it. Leng Bingyue sighed. I'm afraid there are many reasons why instructor he didn't tell us about the downgrade of Southwest Military Military University. Zheng Mu nodded again. Looking at the windy and sandy yard outside the window, Zheng Mu's gaze became sharp. Looking at it now, looking at it now, if the number of students recruited by Southwest Military Attaché University this year is too small. Before they can enroll, they may be downgraded. Hey, Southwest Military Officer. I, a freshman who hasn't entered school yet, have to worry about your future. How can you thank me? The next day, Zheng Mu and others were awakened by a knock on the door and the sound of horns. Guided by several soldiers, they came to an open space outside the city. But when they came out, 
there were already tens of thousands of people neatly arranged here. Every university's reference phalanx can't see the end, but Southwest Military Military University is the only one. General Cheen, why don't you just listen to me and lower the admission criteria? The total number of you is only less than 2,500. Even if you are all admitted, you are just barely getting by. Hearing the words of the old man beside him, General Cheen snorted coldly. Principal Lu, let's consider your own situation. Yu Xingqing University has done a good job this year. There are more than 70 people who just registered. Although this assessment cannot avoid casualties, if the number is not controlled well. General Qin sneered, I'm afraid that your Xingqing University is going to have a school-wide scandal. Lu Weiqi, the vice president of Xingqing University, suddenly turned cold. The tone of voice also became neither salty nor light. This is a matter of trouble for General Qin. For today's assessment, we specially applied for a batch of Feiyin boats. As long as your military avenges your personal revenge unfairly, the kind of accident General Qin said will not happen. General Qin's eyes collided with each other. The invisible confrontation is already unfolding at this moment. Chapter 49 This is the directional card, and there is a help formation talisman on it. Once used, a formation defense will be raised around your body in a short time. Temporarily resisting the monster attacks in the bone-swallowing desert and persisting until the rescue arrives is not a big problem. But you must also be clear that once you use this thing, you will lose your qualifications for the assessment and be directly judged to be eliminated. In addition, this formation will also determine whether you can withstand the coming attack. If the formation determines that you are unable to resist, it will also actively deploy defenses. You can attack other people and compete for their points, but be careful not to kill people. There are three zero zero Feiyin boats in the sky, and the inspectors are watching them all the time, and your azimuth cards also record your battles. This is the light feather talisman, one for each person. For the next assessment, you will take the Feiyin boat, jump from the sky, and land in any area of the bone-swallowing desert freely. In one month, you will arrive at the evacuation location by the deadline and start counting points. Those who have reached the score line announced by the school to apply for will be admitted, and the rest will be eliminated. Listening to the narration of the soldiers who distributed things to them, Zheng Mu's expression suddenly became weird. There is even a Feiyin boat, from the skydiving. Zheng Mu looked suspiciously at the Jean Blue talisman in his hand, hundreds of meters high in the sky, can this thing really prevent people from falling to death? On the other hand, Kai Shinkuan heard that he was about to jump from a height of 100 meters, and his legs immediately softened. Old, boss, you, help me, I'm afraid of heights, what are you doing? This expression certainly attracted the ridicule of several people in the Beiwu University queue. Ha ha ha, look at this Southwest military attaché guy, this kind of bastard dares to come to take the assessment of a first-class university, and I'm afraid he will have to be kicked to get off the Feiyin boat. Ha ha ha, you idiot, monsters in the desert shake their heads when they see this kind of thing. A young man saw Kai Shinkuan's angry gaze, but he didn't care, instead he became more and more wanton. Pointing, with a look of arrogance. Kid, remember, my name is Wang Long, S-rank beast mimic, you'd better not fall into my hands, otherwise, ha ha ha. Zheng Mu's eyes narrowed slightly. S-level professional. It happened so quickly and the information about the Beast Master quickly appeared in his mind. By killing monsters, absorb the soul and blood of the opponent, and transform the body. It can be said that as long as there are some forces in the family in the early stage, find some monsters that can be controlled, and are very powerful in the early stage and let the opponent absorb them, then they can take off directly. And looking at the other party's arrogant attitude, Zheng Mu immediately concluded the fact that the other party's background is not small. Is it a beast master? If I can get out the opponent's ability to absorb monsters and evolve itself. Zheng Mu turned his head, and at an angle that Wang Long didn't notice, his eyes were full of greed. Blood Phoenix Seal, can be used again after a one-month cooling off period. Soon, as all the people participating in the assessment were ready, huge Feiyun boats descended from the sky. This thing is not a technological creation, 
but a joint creation of top life professionals, such as blacksmiths, array mages, and talisman masters. Although it looked quite gorgeous, in Zheng Mu's eyes, it was just that. Follow me for a while. After a faint order, Lang Bingyue and Kai Xinkuan both nodded. Of course, Kai Xinkuan's legs were bent at this moment, and he was lying on the side of the ship, as if he could fall to the ground at any time. As the Feiyin boat rose into the sky and passed through the clouds, it took about an hour and a half. A voice came from the speaker. The Feiyin boat will start to descend to the assessment height, and candidates can officially start the assessment. As soon as the sound fell, Zheng Mu and others felt their bodies lighten, and then the entire Feiyin boat began to fall rapidly. As the clouds in front of him were pierced again, except for the yellow sand, nothing else could be seen below. Zheng Mu didn't wait for the reaction of the candidates around him, but grabbed the two people around him. Jump! Next moment! Ah! Kai Xinkuan's whole body began to distort and deform in the gust of falling wind. Leng Binyue on the side was also holding Zheng Mu tightly with one hand, her pretty face was pale, it was obvious that even though she didn't say anything, the instinctive fear in her body couldn't be concealed. In the sky, several candidates from Beiwu University and Xingqin University laughed when they saw Zheng Mu jumping so quickly. Ha ha ha, it scares them, for fear that they will fall with us if they dance late. This year, there is not a single S-level candidate in the Southwest Military Military University. Just these little ants, don't worry about it. What matters to us is to kill monsters as soon as possible and collect points. On the other side, thousands of Feiyun who are in charge of monitoring and assessment are on board. Standing behind General Qin, when He Guang saw Zheng Mu and the others jump down so early, he couldn't help but let out a little surprise. What's wrong? General Qin frowned, and He Guang hurriedly pointed to the picture on a light curtain in front of him. General, these three are our candidates. I recruited them in Yintong City. There are two A-level occupations and one B-level occupation, but they are all above level 15. Upon hearing this, General Qin immediately looked towards the light curtain. When he saw where Zheng Mu and the others fell, his brows frowned instantly. Since the levels are all above level 15, it proves that the combat power should not be low. Why did you choose the outermost place to land? What are the points of the outermost monsters enough for? In the picture, Zheng Mu and the others are positioned at the periphery of the bone-swallowing desert. To be precise, it should be the closest to Huangsha City. Facing this question, He Guang also had a troubled expression on his face. Well, the young man in charge is Zheng Mu, an A-level mechanic. I think he is not only a very smart person, but also has the aura of a leader. However, after hearing Zheng Mu's occupation, General Qin was taken aback for a moment, then sighed, and looked at the other light curtains. Obviously, after knowing the profession of a mechanic, General Qin has given up on Zheng Mu in his heart. In the early stage of the assessment, everyone formed a team as much as possible and landed in the center of the bone-swallowing desert. By forming a team, kill as many monsters with high points as possible. Who would want to move closer to the evacuation point at the very beginning? On the side, He Guang wanted to say something nice to Zheng Mu, but he opened his mouth but didn't know what to say. Chapter, 50 At the same time. Ah! Snapped. Looking at Kai Xinkuan who was still curled up on the ground and screaming desperately after landing, Zheng Mu went up and kicked the opponent's ass. Okay, stop barking, you've already fallen from the sand. At this moment, Kai Xinkuan finally came to his senses, fumbled around his body in a hurry, and found that he hadn't lost any parts, and there was nothing wrong with him. It was only then that I was still in shock and climbed up with difficulty. Boss, boss, you couldn't tell me just now, I thought I was going to die. Zheng Mu rolled his eyes and ignored this guy. Glancing at Ling Bingyue, he took out a bottle of water and took a sip. After recovering a bit, he also took off the slime backpack behind him. Under the gaze of the two, he put his hand into it. The next moment, he swung his hand violently. Leng Bingyue and Kai Xinkuan just felt that the burning sun suddenly disappeared. A huge shadow has enveloped their heads. Me, 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 shit. Kai Xinkuan admits that he is uneducated, 
but this ship contains his most sincere and purest shocking emotions at the moment. I saw a huge green building suddenly appeared on the original sandy ground. No, it's not a fucking building. One second, he was shocked by the big guy who suddenly appeared in front of him, but the next second, Kaishinkuen finally saw the thing in front of him, which was taller than the two of him, which turned out to be a huge tire and track. Car, car, car. Looking at Kai Shinkuen who was trembling, pointing at the huge mechanical creation in front of him, and couldn't even utter a complete sentence, Xing Mu naturally knew what the other party wanted to say. Nod calmly. That's right, this is indeed a vehicle, the original Dragon Armor 31 Armored Command vehicle, but I modified it a little with my skills. A little makeover. Kai Shinkuen stared blankly at Xing Mu, and then looked at the Big Mac in front of him, which was as tall as a four- or five-story building. I don't know what to say anymore. You call this a little makeover. As for Lang Binyue at the side, this big fellow who had already been brought out by Zheng Mu at this moment was so shocked that he didn't know what to say. After pursing her red lips for a while, she pointed hesitantly at the one in front of her. Even Optimus Prime can only be reduced to a younger brother, reluctantly calling it a car for the time being. Is this also your mechanical creation? Zheng Mu nodded with a smile. Looking at the big guy in front of him, an information panel that only he can see appeared. Name, Transformers Base. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Zheng Mu. Level, Red Brave Class. Durability, 2W2W. Attack Power, 680 to 400. Defense Power, 8700. Skill 1, Base Expansion, which can be expanded from the Chariot Mode in a terrain with enough space to become a full facilities base covering an area of 2 km from Fang Yuan, no cooldown time. Skill 2, Machine Nest, with a built-in space for mechanical nests, which can repair, save, and replenish energy and ammunition for mechanical creations, no cooldown time. Skill 3, The Base's Core, Red Queen, the base is managed by a super smart, Red Queen, who is responsible for daily and battle management, can maximize the base's firepower and various functions, and has no cooldown time. Skill 4, the weapon system Necrosis Laser Cannon, the base's main gun, can accurately attack targets at a distance of no more than 40 kilometers, causing terrifying damage, and the cooling time is 1 hour. Skill 5, the detection system Dome, which can visually hide the main body of the base by distorting light and shielding heat sources, covering 2 kilometers from Fang Yuan, no cooldown time. Skill 6, Firepower System Torrent, the base's auxiliary artillery group, can carry out group coverage bombardment of targets within 25 kilometers, causing a lot of damage, ammunition load, 55. Skill 7, Logistic System Doomsday Expert, the base has a built-in doomsday survival cycle mechanism, comes with the production functions of vegetables, meat, drinking water and other daily necessities, and is equipped with a comfortable living area and external landscape, no cooling time. Skill 8, Power System Magnetoelectric Matrix, all functions of the base are running, you don't have to worry about the total of power energy in living energy, no cooling time. Skill 9, Nano Self Repair System, which can slowly repair the damaged parts of the base. The stronger the functional damage, the longer the repair time, no cooling time. This is why Zheng Mu gave up so much energy. Even taking a lot of risks to create a mechanical creation. The prototype came from a game he liked very much in his previous life. Fortunately, the system is really powerful. After he collected enough materials according to the direction of the blueprint in his mind as much as possible, the system did not let him lose the chain. Not to mention a one-time success. Moreover, he was directly promoted to become a mechanical creature of the Red Brave class. The terrifying attribute directly crushed Optimus Prime and became the strongest mechanical creation under Zheng Mu's command. Zheng Mu looked at the terrifying 20-0-0 durability, is that durability? No, that's Zheng Mu's blood bank. The blood volume of 20 0, 0 plus the sum of the durability of the mechanical creations under his command. Zheng Mu felt that he was standing there now and let some monsters attack. The damage done to him by the other party was not even enough to keep up with the self-healing speed of these mechanical creations under his command. As for the various terrifying skills contained in the base itself, 
the attack power can reach up to 400, which is lost among professionals. Even a powerful professional of LV-67 like He Guan would never dare to fight head-on. And as the base scanned the presence of Xingmu, there was a burst of mechanical sound. One side suddenly and slowly descended a step. Two figures who seemed to have been waiting for a long time appeared on both sides of the entrance of the base vehicle. Welcome master, please get into the car. Zheng Mu, damn it, I forgot. Lang Binyue silently clenched the knife in her hand. Kai Shinkuan, damn, blonde with double ponytails. Boss, you know how to do it. Chapter, 51 I am most afraid of the sudden silence of the air. At this moment, Zheng Mu was ready to take the two of them into the interior of the base vehicle with a proud face just a second ago, and let them see the masterpiece he made. In the next second, he looked at the two figures at the entrance. Zheng Mu was silent. He forgot to put his other masterpieces in this base car before he set off. So much so that looking at Lang Bingyue's eyes that were obviously full of contempt at this moment, Zheng Mu felt that his image in the other party's heart should have been completely shattered. But what could he do? The pursuit of beauty is an inevitable virtue of every human being. Saving the regrets of the past is a temptation that every adult cannot refuse. It just so happens that he now has the ability to make the 3D synthesis who once only existed in the hard drive appear in front of him, talk to them, and tell how much he loved their existence back then. Looking at Leng Bingyue's eyes full of ice, Jing Mu was silent for a long time and spread his hands. I just made a mistake that all men make. Leng Bingyue's eyes were even colder. She squinted and stood at the entrance, looking at their two beautiful figures blankly. When passing by Jing Mu, he snorted coldly. Dirty. Watching the other party go straight into the interior of the base vehicle, Jing Mu felt someone around him tugging at the corner of his clothes. Boss, he he he, it seems that I wrongly blamed you before. I always thought you were an upright gentleman who had no interest in this aspect. I didn't expect he he he, double ponytails, lowly, and blonde hair. Boss, you know how to play. Zheng Mu turned his head to look at the protagonist in Kai Shinkuan's mouth. Standing at the entrance, the blonde lowly looked confused, and looked back at Ling Bingyue, who was clearly angry when she came in. Master, did Mary Rose do something wrong? Hearing the soft and waxy voice, Kai Shinkuan suddenly felt that the customized version of the hard disk goddess robot he brought from Zheng Mu a few days ago was simply scum. Boss, no, foster father, my child has a merciless request, foster father. Kicking away Kai Shinkuan, whose integrity was broken again, Zheng Mu walked towards the car. What this guy thinks, he can figure out what it is with his toes. It would be the best of humanity to get this guy a customized version of the hard disk goddess. Everything around him now, whether it's Tifa, Mary Ross, or my Shiranui, Miss 2B, is all his personal collection. Don't touch anyone but himself. But when Zheng Mu came up, he saw Ling Binyue standing in the corridor, frowning. Look at the width of the corridors around you and think about the size of the car outside. Zheng Mu could tell what the other person was thinking at a glance. Okay, besides the large size of the base vehicle itself, there is also a special space blessing inside. The actual internal space is two to three times larger than what the outside world sees. Hearing this, Leng Binyue took another deep look at Jing Mu. After seeing Tifa and Mary Rose following behind him, he snorted again. The mechanic in your hands really has an effect far beyond that of an A-level profession. It would be even better if some people could focus more on improving their strength. Zheng Mu shrugged and didn't say anything. Led by the two of them, Tifa, they came to the control center of the base vehicle, which is the cab. A beautiful figure in an ancient costume in bright red was quietly waiting here when they walked in. Zheng Mu. Can't you just focus on serious things? At this moment, Leng Binyue finally couldn't suppress the jealousy in her heart anymore, pointing at the calm red face in front of her, she angrily reprimanded her. You really make me look down on you. Zheng Mu blinked his eyes, pondered for a moment, and pointed to the Red Queen who was standing in front of her with her arms around her chest. I think you have misunderstood. The person in front of you is not a character like Tifa and Mary Rose. This is the Red Queen, who is also the super-intelligent core of this base car. 
it is considered an intelligent life in itself, but I gave her its just a specially made body of a bionic human being. Hearing this, Leng Binyue was taken aback for a moment, and when she turned her head, she saw the faint smile in Queen Hong's eyes. Before she could say anything, the Red Queen had already opened her mouth. Miss, please rest assured that even though the Master created Tifa and Mary Rose, the actions you care about have not happened. Please don't worry. Leng Binyue did not expect that the intelligence of the Red Queen could be so high. There was no unnaturalness at all, as if a living person was standing in front of her. But immediately, realizing the meaning of the other party's words, Leng Binyue's pretty face flushed instantly. I, I'm not worried, I, my mother asked me to watch him. Hearing this unconvincing excuse, the Red Queen nodded with a smile, but looked at Zheng Mu who was aside. Master, where are we going next? Saying that, on the big screen in the control room in front of him, a map of the bone-swallowing desert appeared, and their location, as well as the location of Huangsha City, were impressively marked on it. To the direction of Huangsha City, rather than rushing into the flock of sheep and chasing and hunting, I really prefer to sit on the sidelines and wait for the rabbit. The Red Queen nodded, but she didn't see any movement in the next moment, and everyone obviously noticed that the car started to move slowly. At this time Tifa came over with several teacups. Sir, miss, here is tea, coffee, and iced soda, what would you like to drink? Kai Shinkuan looked at Tifa who was wearing a maid outfit, and couldn't help looking longingly in the direction of Zheng Mu again, but the latter directly ignored him. With a sigh, he silently picked up a glass of iced soda. In the control room, Leng Binyue couldn't help frowning as he watched the base vehicle slowly moving on the map. Are you going to snatch points from those who come to the evacuation point before the evacuation point? Zheng Mu nodded, then shook his head again. Points must be obtained from these guys, but we can't just focus on points. Looking at the two, Zheng Mu finally revealed his plan. Whether the bone swallowing desert is big or small, with our current capabilities, it won't take long to find all the people who applied for the Southwest Military Military University. Just the three of us enrolled easily but I'm afraid Southwest Military Military University will not have a few freshmen left this year besides us. If this is the case, relegation is inevitable. On the side, Kai Shinkuan took a soda and gasped. Boss, wouldn't you say that you plan to bring those two zero zero new recruits from the Southwest Military Military University into the Southwest Military Military Academy? That's the points of 2,000 people. Chapter 52 Buzz. In the bone-devouring desert, under the scorching sun, a huge and exaggerated tracked chariot is slowly advancing. The speed of the base car is really not fast, and it is a desert-like terrain. To ensure safe driving, the chassis and tracks are already strong enough. And amidst the waves of dust, monsters will emerge from the sand from time to time, such as vitra scorpions, poisonous snakes and other monsters that are very common in the periphery. It's just that these monsters all chose to hide after seeing such a terrifying chariot that looked like Mount Tai was overwhelming. At the same time, in the base vehicle, Zheng Mu and Leng Binyue, led by Tifa, were curiously visiting the base vehicle. Although the base car was built by Zheng Mu, he never had time to visit it seriously. This is a leisure area, not only with various game consoles and board games, but also a wine cabinet and a sunbathing area. This is the vegetable planting area, the meat storage area, here is the internal pasture, where poultry can be raised, and there are some low-level meat-producing monsters, but it has not yet started. This is the kitchen area. Lord Juggernaut has specially arranged for a bionic chef robot who has downloaded the top culinary materials to work here. Although there is no way to cook food with attributes like a chef-like life professional for the time being, the taste can reach the level of a top chef. This is the rest area. All furniture and daily necessities are available. If you need it, there is also a special massage robot to serve you. When Kai Shinkuan heard that there was even a massage robot, the expression on his face suddenly changed. From an angle that Ling Binyue couldn't see, he winked at Zheng Mu. Passing the unique Morse code between men. Zheng Mu ignored this unscrupulous guy, and looked at Ling Binyue who was looking around the room, especially paying attention to the simulated virtual landscape outside the window. This time we are going to stay in this desert for a month. 
you choose a room by yourself and live in peace of mind. If you need anything, just tell the butler that comes with the room. As long as there is something here, it can be provided. Hearing this, Leng Binyue turned her head and couldn't help rolling her eyes at Ching Mu speechlessly. Do you really regard such an important assessment as your own vacation? Even so, Leng Binyue was still very honest and chose a room near Jing Mu's side. Although I feel in my heart that such behavior is too sorry for the environment I am in now, and it is a bit insulting to this assessment, but there is a huge heated bathtub in the room, and the robot masseur that looks very professional. Leng Binyue couldn't refuse. The huge base car was not moving fast, but it still arrived at the planned destination when Jing Mu and the others were enjoying a sumptuous dinner in the restaurant. We have already arrived at our destination, and San City has also found us in the investigation system. The Red Queen appeared in the restaurant, looking at the dinner that Jing Mu and the others were enjoying, envy flashed in her eyes. Although she now has a body, she looks no different from a normal person in appearance. It is also possible to simulate the action of eating, but it does not feel the joy of enjoying food at all. Jing Mu saw the Red Queen's micro-expression and silently wrote it down. Then it seems that we have to go out to eat, otherwise, such a big guy might be regarded as some unknown monster by the defenders of Jincha City. And just like what Jing Mu said. San City. The visibility in the bone-swallowing desert in the night is not low, coupled with the huge rumbling sound of the base vehicle. Soon the soldiers who were on duty on a daily basis discovered the situation. When looking through the binoculars and seeing a huge vehicle that was comparable to a building in the distance, the soldier's brain froze for a moment, and he hurriedly sounded the alarm. Woo! The sharp sound of the siren instantly attracted the vigilance of the San City's defense forces. When the commander of Jinsha City's defenders rushed over, what caught his eye was a steel monster that was so huge that it had already surpassed the category of vehicle, quietly parked not far outside Jinsha City. Between the two is an arched passage that represents the evacuation point of the candidates. What is this? Quick! Immediately notify the assessment and supervision office. Unknown circumstances have been discovered, and it is suspected that an unknown desert monster has appeared. The commander's face was solemn, but what made him feel dazed was that the probing technique fell on this big guy, and there was no reaction at all. Is there any skill that can block detection? Or is this not a monster? However, it was impossible for the commander to accept that this big guy was a car. At the same time, representatives from the Fayensu Supervision Office, which was preparing to change shifts, and representatives from major universities all received alarms from San City. Immediately, the picture of the Feiyun boat near Jinsha City was called up at this moment. In the quiet night, bursts of silver light reflected, as if on a desert of a vast silver sea. A huge black shadow, square and square, was quietly stopping in front of the evacuation point. What's the situation, are some students about to evacuate? The eggs that were evacuated at this time, how long did it take to evacuate in less than half a day? Moreover, this is the periphery of the bone-swallowing desert. No, what brains are you guys, how can you think that this big guy was created by candidates? This is clearly an unknown monster. What are the people in San City doing? Why haven't they sent this monster's information panel for so long? Also, don't they have any countermeasures? In a Feiyun boat. General Qin, who was about to go to rest, frowned slightly when he saw this sudden change. On the side, He Guang, who was acting as an adjutant, also opened his mouth after seeing the huge vehicle on the light curtain that was four or five stories high. General, this size, based on our long-term experience, is at least a monster above level 60, and we haven't received any investigation information from San City until now. I'm afraid something happened. General Qin nodded. But the bone-swallowing desert has existed for hundreds of years. In their records, there has never been such a strange, sci-fi-looking monster here. Could it be wandering over from another area? Go, we can't let such unknown hidden dangers appear in the assessment area, and let the people of San City take action immediately, whether it is to kill this unknown monster or lure the opponent to other places. Also, find a way to find out the other party's information as soon as possible. Chapter, 53 San City, 
after receiving feedback from the supervision office. The guard's brows suddenly frowned. It seemed that he was overthinking. How could such an exaggerated guy be the work of a certain examinee? He looked at the old man in a purple Taoist robe. Senior Qingyun, have you ever detected the other party's information panel? Hearing this, the old man frowned and shook his head. It's weird, I'm an S-level wandering god Taoist priest, and I've never missed the skill broken eye, but I can't see the slightest information about this guy, General Qi, are you sure this is not your military? What kind of weapon did you get? General Qi suddenly shook his head again and again, with a wry smile on his face. Since powerful professionals have become more and more important in the combat effectiveness of the army, our military has stopped studying these things, and has spent a large amount of military expenditure on the key training of top professionals in the army. Furthermore, Senior Qingyun, you have also served as a special advisor in our army for some years. Have you ever seen such an extremely exaggerated chariot? Now, the old Taoist didn't know what to say, and after a while, he sighed with a solemn expression. Holding a whisk and struggling, he finally expressed the situation he least expected. General Qi, if this is the case, you may need to apply for the God of War Order urgently. God of War Order. General Qi's expression changed drastically. The God of War Order is not something that can be applied for just by applying. Once the God of War Order is approved, the ten top professionals in the Dragon Kingdom will be dispatched. Each of them is an SS-level powerhouse with a high level. Not only is it a high position in the Dragon Kingdom, but it also represents the top level of the world. Senior Qingyun, don't dare to say these words indiscriminately. You understand the horror of the victory order. There are no special circumstances, and there is no danger of destroying the city. It must not be used. The old Taoist's eyes became darker. Then I don't know if a monster of at least LV-80 can reach the danger of destroying a city that you said, General Qi. Looking at General Qi whose face turned pale in an instant, the old Taoist clenched the dust in his hands and gritted his teeth. The old man's delusion-proof eyes can see through all the information that the level does not exceed the old man's twentieth level. Even if there are red brave level or even legendary level shielding treasures, some information can be detected more or less. However, the old man can't see anything about this unknown monster right now and the old man is just at level 60 now. This time, General Chi's face was completely pale. He is not afraid of death. He was the one who requested to be stationed at the edge of the monster area like Jincha City. What makes him feel that the general situation is not good is that at the moment, the staff of the major universities in the city and the candidates in the desert. This is the assessment site for the first-class universities in Longwa. If such a monster whose level is at least LV-80 without knowing the specific information enters the desert, it will definitely be a catastrophe for the entire Dragon Kingdom. The entire batch of excellent professional seedlings were all destroyed. That is directly the fault of an advanced professional. No. That kind of thing can't be allowed to happen. Everyone prepares for the battle. Immediately send an order to the supervision office, we are afraid that we will be in big trouble, and ask them to recall all candidates immediately. Even if our 20 defenders in San City are all killed in battle, we will definitely buy them enough time. General Chi thought of the terrible consequences, the so-called personal life and death and interests, and he threw it behind him on the spot. However, just as he was hysterically giving orders to the adjutant beside him, the adjutant at the side turned a deaf ear to his order as if he had seen something terrifying and inconceivable. Instead, he reached out and pointed in the direction of the monster outside the city. General, General, look quickly. Look at your grandma's legs, she's so fucking desperate, and look at what the hell. General Chi scolded angrily, his heart full of anxiety and the will to fight death. However, when he turned his head and looked outside the city, he uttered a swear word. Kacha kacha. Dang dang dang. A heavy metal sound came from the huge chariot that had been motionless all this time, and then under the dumbfounded gaze of everyone, it actually began to deform on the spot. In the blink of an eye, a villa with a sci-fi and military style appeared in front of everyone. It sits directly in front of San City, firmly blocking the exit of the withdrawal point. On the side, 
the old Taoist twitched the formula in his hand, and his eyes burst into light again. The delusion-breaking eye, was cast again. However, different from nothing before, this time, a few lines of information suddenly appeared in his eyes. Name, Transformers Base. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Gone. However, just this is enough to make the old man excited. Hastily tugged General Chi who was already sluggish at the side. Quickly, quickly asked the examination and supervision office, is there another candidate named Zheng Mu, who is a mechanic by profession? Quick. Zheng Mu. Mechanic. Ah, hurry up, ask. General Qi came back to his senses, looked at the nervous and surprised look of the old Taoist priest, and carefully glanced at the huge building outside the city that had been unfolded and occupied at least one square kilometer. Senior Qinyan, what did you see? The latter nodded. But he muttered to himself. Mechanic? If the old man remembers correctly, it seems to be a very weak profession, right? Isn't there no way to create any mechanical creations, so there is no chance for growth in the early stage? How could this? Although I can only briefly see the name of the deformable big guy in front of me, as well as the designer. Qin Yun old man's heart has already surged infinitely. Just relying on the mechanical creation of this scale at present, the level is at least the existence of purple rare level. If they were really among the new professionals in this year, some of them might have watched this year's first class university entrance examination. At the same time, the representatives of the various colleges and universities who were also paying close attention to the situation in Huangsha City also saw the exaggerated process of the base car transforming into a huge building from the scene. The shocking picture directly stunned everyone. On the Feiyin boat at Southwest Military Attaché University, even the well-informed General Qin opened his mouth in shock after seeing this scene. What it is? At this moment, the urgent inquiry from Huangsha City came again. He Guang, who was standing behind General Qin, stood up in horror after hearing the name machinist Zheng Mu spoken by the other party. General. Zheng Mu is one of us. Chapter, 54. Is Zheng Mu one of us? Seeing He Guang standing up excitedly, his face flushed red, General Qin thought of the handsome young man who followed behind him and was highly praised by He Guang. That Cheng Mu from the mechanic? General Qin couldn't help asking again. He Guang nodded. At this moment, General Qin finally looked at the correspondent beside him with extreme anxiety. Report to Huangsha City immediately. The mechanic Cheng Mu is a candidate of our Southwest Military Military University. Ask them immediately, what happened to Zheng Mu? As he spoke, he immediately gave another order to the other party. Find me the location of Zheng Mu immediately. I want to confirm his location immediately. Suddenly, in the control room on Feiyin's boat, one after another light curtains began to change. At the same time, the inquiry from Huangsha City was also transmitted to representatives of other universities. When Lu Weiqi, Vice President of Xingqing University, heard the name Huang Shaqing asked, he looked at a secretary-like person behind him. Mechanic Xing Mu, is there anyone among our candidates for this year's exam? Hearing this, the secretary immediately checked a tablet and shook his head. Lu Weiqi nodded and didn't say anything more, but he immediately made people inquire about Xing Mu's current location. Although it is still unclear why Huang Sha City asked for information about a candidate, the huge building in the picture must be related to this person named Xing Mu. It seems that the person from Huangsha City has found any information. But let's not talk about any machinist who can create such a mechanical creation. Even if he can create it, it is absolutely impossible among these students. Lu Weiqi has already started to think about who is the mechanic in Longwa. After thinking about it for a while, he didn't think of anyone who would give full play to this tasteless profession. However, he and the people around him didn't notice. A balding middle-aged man standing behind them, his eyes became flustered after hearing the words of Zheng Mu and the mechanic. On the other side, representatives from Beiwu University. Isn't there a mechanic named Zheng Mu among our candidates? It seems that Huangsha City made a mistake, and they really are, so we can't think about it carefully. There are no rookies who don't even have level 20 at most. 
how can there be such a horrible guy? A certain Beiwu University's admissions director in Yuntong City turned pale and became worried. However, this kind of situation happened one after another on the Feiyun boats of other schools. Those who were in charge of recruiting students in Yuntong City couldn't help praying and comforting themselves in their hearts. Impossible. How could such a terrifying thing be created by a newcomer who has just awakened for a few months? It must be fake. Yes, Huangsha City must have made a mistake. However, this time of self-comfort did not last long. When the staff of various colleges and universities, after some manipulations, it was finally time to call out Ching Mu's current position. The last line of defense in those people's hearts finally collapsed completely. Mr. Zhang, you, what's wrong with you? In the control room of Fei Yun Zhou of Xingqing University. The balding middle-aged man looked at the mark representing Zheng Mu on the light curtain, the position on the map, and the position of the big guy in Huangsha City at the moment, completely gentle, and his legs softened suddenly. He fell directly behind him. The sudden movement attracted Lu Weiqi's puzzled stare. Although he didn't know why this person reacted so suddenly, it definitely had something to do with the mechanic named Sheng Mu right now. What's the situation? Zhang Qingdong. I need an explanation. Lu Weiqi's dangerously shining eyes made the other party's face turn pale with fright, trembling, but he couldn't even utter a complete sentence. But at this moment, the secretary at the side suddenly widened his eyes. Principal. Look quickly. Someone has come out of that big guy in Huangsha City. As soon as these words came out, everyone turned their heads to look at this guy who was already limp on the ground. I saw that in the picture, on the roof of the huge and quite military-style villa, several figures slowly walked out of it, and each of them seemed to be carrying something vaguely in their hands. Lu Weiqi frowned, stepped forward, and watched carefully. That's a grill. He murmured uncertainly, and at this moment in the Feiyun boat of the Southwest Military Military University, General Qin also asked the same question. Aside, He Guang hesitated for a moment, then nodded. That, it seems to be. General Qin's brows were suddenly furrowed, his mind was full of doubts about Zheng Mu at the moment. Is that big guy really a mechanical creation made by Zheng Mu? If this mechanical creation has combat power, it must be good. In that case, wouldn't it be possible to get more points by going to the most central area of the desert? Why did it come to the outermost periphery? And this guy and the two candidates who are with him, the points are still round zero. However, at this moment, on the leaderboard that only supervisors like them can see, someone has already broken through 500, and this number is still rising. Not only has the outermost edge been selected, but there is no action to kill monsters at all what is this kid planning to do? In Huangsha City, General Qi and the others also discovered each other the first time Zheng Mu stepped onto the rooftop. After hearing his subordinates confirm the other party's identity, General Qi's tense nerves finally relaxed a little. In other words, this thing in front of me is really a mechanical creation made by Zheng Mu. The facts were before his eyes, let alone he couldn't believe it, even the old Qinyun old man couldn't believe it. His lips moved, and he sighed. Sure enough, there are talented people from generation to generation, mechanic that is, although you don't know what height you can reach in the future, at least the word tasteless will be thrown away by the other party. At this moment, General Qi knew that it was not some monster attacking the city and relaxed, but he didn't want to care about whether the future of mechanics was worthless or not. If he made this huge thing, why didn't he go kill monsters quickly and earn points, but here grill it? On the rooftop, Lang Bingyue looked at the Huangsha city not far away. Although it was dark at the moment, the figures on the top of the city were faintly visible. The other party is obviously paying attention to them. Zheng Mu, don't we take the assessment too seriously? Looking at the grilled skewers that are sizzling with oil in their hands, exuding an attractive aroma, and a table full of dishes and drinks on the side. Leng Bingyue was confused. Chapter, 55 There is still a month left, what are you in a hurry for? Eat a good meal today, take a bath in the evening, have a massage, and go into battle with full energy tomorrow morning, wouldn't you? Zheng Mu rolled his eyes, then pointed at himself with a stinky face. Sister Bingyue, from now on, you will be my big brother with you, 
and you will enjoy your blessings in the future. Am I a dignified mechanic, an A-level professional, and will I be the same as those boorish guys who wield knives and guns all day long? We are playing with brains, skills, and formations. If you do monster fighting and upgrading yourself, what's the difference from the brick movers on the construction site? Ask G. Cohen, among the workers working in their construction company, is there anyone who has lived a good life? Listening to Zheng Mu's distorted fallacies and looking at the other party's indifferent face, Leng Binyue and Leng Binyue fell silent. A reckless man with a knife and a gun. Leng Binyue looked down at the long knife at his waist. Kai Xingkuan looked at the big gun on his back. No doubt they felt offended. Seeing that Jing Mu was not in a hurry, the two looked at each other, and could only sit down silently, showing off the dishes in front of them. According to Jing Mu, they will start killing monsters early tomorrow morning to earn points. Today you have to eat and drink enough to keep your spirits up. However, their behavior fell into the eyes of the supervisory representatives of the major universities, but they completely gave up the assessment. The information about Zheng Mu has been known by everyone. Among them, when Lu Weiqi, the vice principal of Xingqing University, found out that this person came to them at the beginning of Xingqing University, but was pushed into the arms of Southwest Military Military University by one of their idiot admissions directors. Hao Xuan couldn't hold back and threw the other party off the Feiyun boat and fed the monsters in the bone swallowing desert. Principal, calm down. A mechanic is a worthless profession. It's not just Mr. Zhang who thinks so. It's an open fact in the entire Blue Star. Who would have thought that no mechanic could make mechanical creations in hundreds of years? Why? This Jing Mu actually figured it out. Yes, yes, principal, even if he has created a mechanical creation, you can see that he is locked on the outermost edge, and he doesn't even have the courage to walk to the central area. This kind of person is a waste. Principal, even if a mechanic is not weak, it is only an A-level profession, isn't it? This is recognized by God. Our Xingqing University only has four S-level candidates this year. Under the persuasion of one by one of his subordinates, Lu Weiqi finally let the unlucky bald man go temporarily. He snorted coldly. You better hope this Jing Mu isn't a talent to focus on, or else. Everyone looked at the coldness in Lu Weiqi's eyes, and couldn't help but move away from the admissions officer who rejected Jing Mu. Without Jing Mu's knowledge. The Feiyun boat in the sky broadcast live the footage from their side to the monitoring office in real time. After eating and drinking one by one, they went straight back to their rooms. At night, tens of thousands of candidates in the bone-swallowing desert live and sleep in the open, and are always on the lookout for monsters that may rush out of the surrounding area at any time. While guarding against monster attacks, they also watch their companions around them vigilantly. Fear of being backstabbed by the same kind. And when these people were having a hard time, Jing Mu, who was in the villa room at the moment, drank red wine and took a bath under the gentle service of Tifa and Mary Rose. Then he lay down on the big soft bed and was massaged by two pairs of weak and boneless little hands. After only a while, there were bursts of snoring without the slightest burden. There was no movement on Jing Mu's side all night. However, what he didn't know was that when he fell asleep happily, at this moment on the Feiyun boat of the Southwest Military Military University, General Qin and the others had bloodshot eyes. He stared at the picture on his side for a whole night. It wasn't until Zheng Mu stretched his waist and appeared on the rooftop again in the early morning to exercise his muscles and bones that they had to accept the fact that this guy had really been wasted all day. This kid. Is he really not in a hurry? Still think that our Southwest Military Military University will definitely lower the standards for him in order to recruit students this year? When General Qin said this, the atmosphere in the room became quite cold. On the side, He Guang was also treated by Zheng Mu's behavior without the slightest sense of competition. Lei didn't know what to say. Think back to the time when he took the university assessment, on the first day he entered the hunting ground, he started a frenzied scramble. Snatch other people's points, snatch the monsters that others have taken a fancy to in advance, snatch the monsters that others are about to kill, and snatch everything that can make the opponent eliminate. During the assessment, the examinees turned into beasts one after another. In this Colosseum, the strongest was determined. 
General, Jing Mu is not an ignorant person. I think he must have his own plan, and he will definitely start to attack today. He Guang's words did not get any response from General Qin. How about taking action? They are at the outermost edge of the bone-swallowing desert. Basically, they are all low-level monsters of LV-10, LV-15. It takes only one or two points to kill one of these monsters. It is not difficult to kill, but you must know that this place is a vast desert. Monsters don't move in groups. In such a situation, you manage to find a target and get a point. Others in the center of the desert can kill an advanced monster and get more than ten times as many points as Jing Mu. In this case, let alone what got the ranking. General Qin even felt that Jing Mu couldn't even reach the score line of their Southwest Military Military University. At the same time, Leng Binyue, who also woke up, was also full of energy, and came out after washing with red faces. Ha ha ha, boss, the massage robot you designed is so comfortable, I fell asleep shortly after last night, of course, it would be great if you also gave them a bionic beauty. Glancing disdainfully at Kai Shinkuen, who was still full of thoughts, Ling Binyue asked about today's business. Shouldn't we start to act today? Zheng Mu smiled lightly and snapped his fingers. Then, under the watchful eyes of the Feiyun boat in the sky and the defenders of Huangsha City, after the transformation, the base, which had not been moving at all, suddenly started to move. Boom! A steel gate slowly opened, and along with it, a roof unfolded from both sides. It reveals the structure full of technology inside. The next moment, under the gaze of all eyes, metal eagles flew into the sky in large numbers. Taking a rough look, there are at least four or five hundred of them. Standing on the rooftop, Zheng Mu's gaze towards the vast desert was full of fighting spirit. It's also time to introduce ourselves to our competitors. The next moment, a series of humanoid metal creations walked out of the warehouse with neat steps. Chapter, 56 Boasting Amidst the heavy and orderly footsteps, AT-800 was fully armed, with an ammunition belt wrapped around his body, ten electric grenades around his waist, and an exaggerated four-barreled shotgun in his hand. They walked out of the warehouse neatly. Five people in a row, ten people in a row. There were fifty neatly. On the Huangsha city, Qin Yun, who had been waiting for a long time for Zheng Mu, a mechanic who suddenly emerged from the army, had a strong curiosity, and the first time he walked towards the neat queue that came out. Played delusion breaking eye. After Zheng Mu took the initiative to open some display permissions, the latter got some information about the T-800 immediately. Name, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-800. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Zheng Mu. Level, Blue Elite. Durability, 800800. Attack Power, 40 to 800. Defense Power, 700. Hiss, this attribute old Daoist Qin Yun gasped, secretly shocked. Compared with the previous inspection of the base vehicle, the information of this inspection is obviously more comprehensive. Not only the attributes of these mechanical creations have been detected, but also the names of skills that do not explain the specific effects. However, this alone is enough to cause shock. In his opinion, the attributes of these mechanical creations under Zheng Mu's command named T-800 are comparable to those of ordinary LV-20 professionals. The most important thing is the number of opponents. While he was investigating here, another warehouse gate was slowly lifted. There was a sound of heavy footsteps that had just appeared, but this time it was slightly unnecessary. Amidst the rustling sounds, one after another crawled on the ground, like beast-shaped mechanical creations of ferocious beasts, came out of the warehouse. Surprisingly, there are also forty neatly. Name, Liquor. Attack Power, 160 to 480. Defense Power, 760. The same blue elite class, its attributes are slightly different from T-800, some are strong and some are weak. However, from the skills of the other party who only revealed the name, Qin Yun Old Daoist seems to have smelled a dangerous breath from the other party. On the side, General Qi shrank his pupils when he saw these neat mechanical creations coming out of Zheng Mu's base. Well, shouldn't these be all mechanical creations named Zheng Mu? He murmured. 
However, at the same time, such a question was also unconsciously asked from the mouths of the representatives of the major universities on the Feyen boat above the sky. Quick! Give me information about these mechanical creations immediately. Lu Weiqi, the vice principal of Xingqing University, had murderous intentions again, and there was a clear haze in his eyes at this moment. In just a few minutes, an investigation report from Huangsha City spread to all the Feyen boats. After seeing the amazing attributes of the T-800 and liquor in the information, Lu Weiqi clenched his teeth tightly. He indifferently ordered to the secretary beside him. I heard that there is a small town in the southwest that doesn't have a contact point for our Xingqing University. Let teacher Zhang Qingdong go. The secretary nodded silently, and the other staff of Xingqing University standing behind all looked at Zhang Qingdong who had passed out after double-gazing with complicated eyes. In their view, this guy was wrong to some extent. After all, who would have thought that the mechanic profession, which has always been recognized as a tasteless job, would shine in the hands of this kid named Xing Mu? It can be seen from the one-sided information in their hands at the moment. It is definitely very easy for Xing Mu to earn enough points to enter a top-ranked university. As for their Xingqin University, there could have been an extra student who was a mechanical roadblazer. This honor is also worth boasting about for Xingqin University. However, it was because of this guy's random act, and such an honor was about to be taken advantage of by the Southwest Military Military University. Lu Weiqi looked at the group of mechanical creations that had already strode toward the desert in great strides. Ask the secretary on the side. The few S-level newcomers who signed up for us this year, how many points do they have now? Hearing this, the secretary immediately operated on the tablet. Huang Feng Mage Sang Luo currently has 861 points, ranking first. Wine Swordsman Gu Ming currently has 612 points, ranking third. The Grudge Wizard Jiang Lan Lan currently has 577 points, ranking eighth. Gu Feng, the Spirit Guide, currently has 560 points, ranking ninth. Hearing this, the ominous premonition in Lu Weiqi's heart eased a little. The number one S-level professional, Huang Feng Mage Sang Luo, had reached level 15 when he took part in the assessment, and this profession's skills in the desert environment were added. It can be said that this kid took advantage of it. Catch up at this time, even if the opponent has so many mechanical creations in the periphery, it is absolutely impossible to catch up. Lu Weiqi murmured in his heart. And General Qin, who was also paying attention to Zheng Mu's situation, also punched the table in front of him angrily after seeing the current scoreboard. Boom! Such a small movement caused the Feiyun boat to shake. However, he was still pointing at Zheng Mu on the screen with a look of resentment, and started to fight monsters to collect points, with a look of aggrieved and unwillingness. Facing He Guang behind him, he blamed him all the time. Is this what you call maturity? Steady. Obviously has the strength to be able to lead far in the early stage, why do you have to go to the outskirts of the desert? Didn't you make it clear to him that if you get the ranking, you can get extra rewards? Chapter, 57 Ha ha ha, I can finally start, my big gun is already hungry and thirsty. Kai Shinkuen has been impatient for a long time, he wants to kill the special kill, use the full set of purple rare equipment given to him by Zheng Mu, and get his own honor in this competition of geniuses in the Dragon Kingdom. At this moment, after Zheng Mu ordered the mechanical creation to be dispatched. At the very first moment, he turned over and rode on a liquor, and rushed towards the desert like a general on an expedition. Aren't you going? Leng Binyue looked at Zheng Mu who was motionless, and asked in doubt. The latter shrugged and smiled meanly. The one on top is troublesome, I am the one who likes to be on top. Leng Binyue spat immediately, jumped down, rode on the back of a liquor, and rushed in the opposite direction to Kai Xingkuen. Zheng Mu stood on the top floor of the base, and with a thought, a huge Jean blue light curtain sand table appeared in front of him. Before departure, after sweeping the white common grade bird materials in the trading center, the number of patrol eagles under Zheng Mu's command has increased from 50 at the beginning to 500 crazily. 500 patrol eagles spread out quickly above the sky, forming a huge scouting network. The coverage area is at least 150 kilometers. 
Zheng Mu held a cup of mellow hot coffee in his hand. Tifa's coffee grinding skills are quite good. And in just a few minutes, on John Blue's light curtain sand table, one after another, red markers began to appear in large areas, but they were the monster positions that had been detected by the patrol eagle. As soon as the red monster target appeared, Zheng Mu saw the yellow mark point representing his own unit on the sand table, and rushed towards the target precisely. The running speed of T-800 is very fast, and as a mechanical creature, it is tireless. They all turned into black shadows in the desert. Behind a huge sand dune, several khaki monsters that looked like wolves were gathering here in twos and threes. At this moment, they were gnawing at the corpse of an unidentifiable monster. However, before they knew it, a terminator had already quickly run to the other side of the dune. There was no monster in sight, but he took off an electric grenade without hesitation and threw it out. The shock grenade drew a graceful arc. It just turned over the top of the dune, and landed precisely in the middle of several monsters. Boom! Crack! In the huge explosion, fierce thunder erupted, and several monsters had no chance to react at all. When they froze and hissed and screamed. There was a sound of rolling yellow sand, sliding and shoveling down from the dune. The sound of the four-barreled shotgun in his hand was decisive. Bang bang bang! The gunfire stopped, and on the yellow sand, four corpses of monsters whose heads had been beaten into pieces lay on the ground. But the Terminator, who had done all of this, stood up abruptly in the middle of the sliding shovel, and rushed in another direction without looking back. You killed the Desert Wolf LV-14, you got 22 experience points. You killed the Desert Wolf LV-16, you got 24 experience points. You killed the Desert Wolf LV-13, you got 18 experience points. You killed the Horned Vine Python LV-22, you got 266 experience points, the Green Excellent Material Poisonous Python Tendon. You kill. A series of prompts passed across the panel, but Zheng Mu turned a blind eye to them. Picking up the card that records points from his pocket, his points are increasing rapidly at a speed visible to the naked eye. In just half an hour, the points on Zheng Mu's card have already broken through 100. Hey, life is really lonely like snow. Zheng Mu sat down on the deck chair on the roof board, and then thought about it, but suddenly snapped his fingers. The next moment, Tifa who was waiting on the side gently bent down. Master, do you have any orders? Zheng Mu pointed to a wall in front of him. Find a projector and come over and watch a movie to pass the time. On Huangsha City. After watching the mechanical creations set off one after another, Zheng Mu stayed alone. General Qi, who had been paying attention to the opponent, suddenly looked at this huge base curiously. He didn't follow. Don't those mechanical creations need to be manipulated? Don't blame him for having this question. In their view, if a mechanic is really freed from the obstacles of mechanical creation blueprints, his fighting style should be the same as that of a summoner. However, summoner also needs to control the summoned objects within a certain range. On Zheng Mu's side, in the blink of an eye, the mechanical creature has completely disappeared from sight. Suddenly, General Qi seemed to have thought of something, hesitated for a moment, and glanced at the old Taoist beside him. Senior Qinyun, you said that Zheng Mu is obviously free now, so is it okay for us to chat with him in the past? As soon as these words came out, the old Taoist's eyes were fixed, and his hand stroking his beard paused slightly. Visibly moved. It's not good, principal. Something is not right. On a Feiyin boat of Xingqing University, Lu Weiqi, who had just rested for a long time, was suddenly awakened by a loud knock on the door. The next moment, when he opened the door, he saw an anxious secretary holding a tablet computer. Principal, it's not good, that mechanic, he he's not right. Something wrong. Surprised, Lu Weiqi took the computer from the opponent's hand. Then I was horrified to see that Jing Mu, who originally had zero points, successfully broke the hundred in less than an hour after he had just rested. Lu Weiqi only felt his scalp tingling for a while. It was almost too late to think, and immediately came to the control room. Quick! Tweak me the picture of mechanic Jing Mu. The next moment, Jing Mu's picture appeared in the light curtain. However, 
Contrary to imagination, Zheng Mu led his army of mechanical creations to kill the quartet. There is also no picture of a group besieging an advanced monster. In the pointing screen, Zheng Mu is leisurely lying on a deck chair on the roof, holding a big cup of popcorn. On a projector, the movie screen appears. The secretary muttered softly. That seems to be the recently released two zero zero blows. Chapter 58 That seems to be the recently released two zero zero blows. Hearing the secretary's whisper, everyone on the side looked at him speechlessly. Is now the time to pay attention to this kind of thing? Or are you planning to let the Southwest Military Attaché University deprive the other party of his qualifications for the examination because he watched a certain movie? Lu Weiqi also glared at the secretary angrily, and then hurriedly asked the staff in charge of assessment and monitoring. This candidate named Xin Mu is here. Why is the score soaring so fast? Haven't you received any abnormal alerts? He's obviously cheating. However, in the face of Lu Weiqi, a big shot at Xingqing University, several personnel in charge of monitoring looked at each other and shook their heads helplessly. Principal Lu, please calm down. It is our responsibility to monitor the battles and points of all candidates, but I'm sorry, this candidate Jing Mu has no problems. As he spoke, before Lu Weiqi could say anything else, the light curtain in front of them turned again. In the picture, a mechanical creature under the command of Zheng Mu is killing monsters on the periphery of the bone-devouring desert cleanly without any human command. When these monsters faced mechanical creations such as the T-800 or the liquor, there was no room for resistance at all. Under the control of several technicians, there were more and more light curtains in front of them soon, all of which were real-time pictures of the mechanical creations under Zheng Mu's command. What made everyone present gasp even more? The speed of these mechanical creations simply exceeded their cognition. Every time I attack, it seems that if I look for a certain direction, there will definitely be monsters. After arriving at the fastest speed, I will kill the monsters instantly with the most thunderous means. After that, he rushed in other directions without hesitation. These guys are like prey in the jungle who have seen everything. One person's soliloquy fell into everyone's ears, and everyone nodded unconsciously. However, Lu Weiqi was looking at Jing Mu's points column, which was improving rapidly at a speed visible to the naked eye, and when he was about to break through 200, his eyes became cold and severe. I think there is still a problem with Jing Mu. You have also said how these mechanical creations know the exact location of the monsters in the desert. You know, even if we are on the Feiyun boat now, we can't be like those mechanical creations under his command. Usually, to be that precise. Hearing this, several technicians frowned, and they couldn't explain this phenomenon clearly. However, it was obvious that this was beyond their control, so they shook their heads. Principal Lu, I'm sorry that we can't stop the candidate's point calculation because of your statement that there is no real evidence of cheating. If you have any objections, you can apply to the higher authorities to intervene in the investigation. Now Lu Weiqi's teeth were about to be crushed. If Sheng Mu is just a little more eye-catching than other professionals, that's all. But where is it so simple now? In two hours, the amount of points will exceed 200. This speed has directly caught up with the half-day harvest of S-level professionals. Thinking about how much their Sanqing University publicized the four S-level professionals before the assessment, it seemed like they wanted the whole world to know that the future of these four people belonged to their Xingqing University. In this case, once a month later, the best result of the first place was actually an A-level mechanic from the Southwest Military Military University, and the deadliest mechanic was still actively rejected by their Xingqing University. Thinking of this, Lu Weiqi only felt his scalp tingling for a while. If that's the case, their Xingqing University may directly contract the throne of Longwa's funny jokes for a whole year. Hiss. No, I can't let this Xing Mu go on like this. Lu Weiqi frowned, pondered for a moment, then hurriedly walked outside. At the same time, Zheng Mu's unique rate of points increase immediately attracted the attention of other Feiyun supervisors on board. The representatives of all first-class universities immediately asked the inspectors to give an explanation. However, when they saw the mechanical creations under Zheng Mu's command in the light curtain, they did not hesitate at all. 
Like a sandstorm sweeping across the bone-tuning desert, these monsters on the periphery were wiped out one by one, and everyone couldn't sit still. Is this kid too exaggerated? At the same time, in the Feiyun boat of the Southwest Military Military University where General Qin and the others were staying, General Qin was both shocked and worried. Before that, Zheng Mu played badly at the start all day, and made General Qin, a man who acted vigorously and resolutely, very angry. However, looking at Zheng Mu's soaring points and rankings on the leaderboard, General Qin became worried again. He Guang looked bewildered, not understanding why the general was not happy with such a brilliant performance, but instead became worried. General Qin saw He Guang's doubt at a glance and sighed. Do you wonder why I am worried when I see his points increase so quickly? The reason is very simple, he is too brilliant, too fast. Even if his improvement speed is a little slower. According to this speed, Zheng Mu can sprint from the bottom to the first position in one day. How can you let other universities get out of it? As he said that, General Qin looked at the wonderful performances of Zheng Mu's mechanical creations in the light curtain, and muttered with a tangled face. Hey, even at one-third of this speed, no, one-fourth of it will be the first place. I'm afraid those guys will definitely be in trouble now. Hearing this, He Guang suddenly became worried. General, then we can't really invalidate Jing Mu's grades, can we? This can't be done. The supervision office can't say anything about the points he earned with his own ability. They object to it for nothing. Seeing He Guang's displeased expression, General Qin laughed again abruptly. Ha ha ha, old he, old he, it seems that you are really optimistic about this Xing Mu. I'm worried about you. I'm just worried that those guys are probably going to jump up and down like they've been stepped on their tails. It's not us. The Southwest Military Attaché University is afraid of them. Having said that, General Qin suddenly took a deep breath, his eyes became sharper. Due to some of our problems over the years, the freshmen of the college have not been as good as the last, which gave these bastards from Xingqin University a chance to run around, but this time, I want to see, these guys still want to if you want to be a rogue, do you have enough bones? Grandma, after so many years of bird anger, I finally have a chance to let it out. As soon as the words fell, General Qin's adjutant came suddenly. General, Xingqin University and Beiwu University, together with seven other first-class universities, jointly requested the Supreme Supervision Department to revoke Xing Mu's grades. Chapter, 59 Outside Huangsha City The sound of ha ha came from the projector, and the popcorn in Zheng Mu's arms scattered all over the ground in shock. Damn it, Ji Kuan, you bastard, I asked you to download a movie tape, what did you fucking download for me? Zheng Mu hurriedly asked Tifa to turn off the projector in a hurry. Ignoring the popcorn spilled all over the floor, I turned on the connected computer in three steps in two. When he saw that one of the above movies was more explosive than the other, and worthy of being criticized secretly, he had the heart to kill Kai Shinkuan. Fortunately, he is the only one here, otherwise. This little friend. A voice came from not far behind, Zheng Mu stood up and looked in the direction of the voice vigilantly. But I saw an old man in a purple Taoist robe, stepping on a flying sword at the moment, um, holding a man in a military uniform. Um, did you see that? Zheng Mu asked quietly, before the old Taoist could say anything, he hurriedly said. Would you believe me if I said that I didn't download these movies, and I'm not interested in them at all? Faced with Zheng Mu's question, it was Ziyun Laodao and General Qi who became embarrassed. To be honest, I didn't pay attention at first, but when they just came here, they were also taken aback by that strange sound of um, ha, ha, ha. Good guy, you are really alone in the wild, and you have completely let yourself go. Is this kind of movie even released to the public? The two smiled awkwardly, neither nodding nor shaking their heads at the moment. In the end, the old Taoist Qin Yun rolled his eyes and said with a smile. Don't be nervous, little friend. General Qi and I have also come over from your age. We are both men. What's wrong with you? We won't be free in gossip about this kind of thing, will we? Hearing this, Zheng Mu nodded and asked Tifa to put away the things and send them to his room. Well, if we want to correct the bad habits of Dash 7 Zheng Kai Xinkuan, 
we must at least understand these bad habits before we can prescribe the right medicine. Zheng Mu thought this way, but on the surface he waved at the two of them calmly, indicating that they could land at will. That is to say, in the monitoring of the Red Queen, the two of them obviously had no malice, otherwise, it would be impossible to get close to here, and they were discovered by Zheng Mu. This senior, and this general, are the defenders of Huangsha City? Zheng Mu didn't feel restrained in the face of two people who were obviously not low in rank and might even be stronger than the Hikuang he knew. Calmly, Tifa and Mary Rose prepared tea for them. Seeing Tifa's skillful tea making skills, Qing Yun's eyes lit up obviously. He looked up and down at Tifa, who was making tea silently, and then when he looked at Zheng Mu, his eyes were full of admiration. Old Qing Yun is one of the guards in Huangsha City. You have also seen it, a Taoist priest. As for this one, you should have seen it, General Qi Qin, the military guard of Huangsha City. Zheng Mu was noncommittal to the ordinary Taoist priest said by the old Taoist. The ordinary Taoist profession is only sea level. People at that level will definitely not be able to reach the current level. I don't know the two seniors, are you looking for me for something? If I remember correctly, it is during the assessment period, and outsiders are not allowed to communicate with candidates. As he said that, Zheng Mu also made an expression of you are hurting me. Hearing this, Qin Yun old Daoist laughed, raised his eyebrows, pointed to Huangsha city not far away, and then pointed to the base where Zheng Mu was at his feet. He he, it's unfortunate that we haven't made any mistakes now. My friend's current location happens to be within the guard patrol area of Huangsha city. We're just conducting daily patrols. Little friend is still in the assessment and has not gone out of bounds, and we are also on patrol, and have not gone out of bounds. Seeing the two smiling faces, Zheng Mu immediately understood. It is such a coincidence that the current location I am in is at the intersection of the assessment area of the Tungu Desert and Huangsha City. Zheng Mu nodded reassuringly. Then don't you know why the two seniors are looking for me? Old Daoist Qin Yun and Qi Tai looked at each other, and the old Taoist smiled and pointed to the base under his feet. Little friend, this old man is very curious. I don't know what level the mechanical creation you made is. Of course, if you don't want to say, we don't force it. It's purely personal curiosity. After all, you also know the mechanic this profession. The old Taoist didn't say the latter, but Zheng Mu understood it completely. Zheng Mu nodded, but smiled slightly. Senior, you're just asking for information about my whole cards. Are you bullying the younger generation by asking directly like this? As he spoke, Zheng Mu blinked his eyes, with complex lights shining in his eyes. Um, does that little friend want to know something from us? Seeing that the other party did not directly reject, Zheng Mu was overjoyed. He was still a little worried about how to deal with the follow-up matters, but the two of them came to their door. Zheng Mu lowered his voice a little, as if afraid of being heard. I don't know senior, can you tell me about the score line of Southwest Military Military University this year, I. Before Zheng Mu finished speaking, the two shook their heads without hesitation. Qi Tai was even more serious about his words. Student Zheng Mu, we really want to make friends with you. After all, with the profession of a mechanic, you are the only one in the whole blue star. But some rules are rules and cannot be surpassed. Qin Yun old man nodded again and again. Seeing that the two were about to stand up and say goodbye, Zheng Mu hastily called out. Those two seniors, it shouldn't be a problem to reveal the score line of the first class university examination last year, right? Boy, I don't have any background in my family, so there is really no place to get this information. This question caused the two of them to pause, exchanged glances for a while, and then sat back down again. If it's last year's assessment standard, it's not really a secret. People in some connections know more about it. Chi Tai extended a gesture directly. 9000. Chi Tai nodded. The old Taoist on the side added quietly. Last year's assessment was conducted on Jinghai Skull Island. The difficulty is probably similar to this year's. Hearing this, Zheng Mu immediately had a general idea. He bowed his hands to the two to express his gratitude, and seeing the curious eyes of the two at the same time, he moved slightly closer. 
Mouth slowly said a few words. Hiss. Really? But, but you're just a rookie mechanic at level 19? When I heard Jing Mu's answer about the level of the base car under my feet. Old Daoist Qinyan accidentally lost his beard. Qi Tai was even more startled and jumped on the spot. Seeing the appearance of seeing a ghost between the two, Jing Mu smiled normally and bowed his hands again. I also asked the two seniors to help me keep it secret. It is indeed a mechanical creation of this level, which is really rare for me. It took me a lot of effort to achieve the current results. Qing Yun Old Wei, Tai. How did this guy come up with the Red Hero level mechanical creation in less than two months? It sounds like it took most of his life. If it wasn't for you, you would be a newcomer who has just awakened for less than two months. They really believed each other's lies. The news was so intimidating that the two of them didn't recover for a while. After a long silence, Old Taoist Union finally let out a long sigh. Ha ha ha, it seems that this year's assessment will really have something to watch. While the three of them were chatting, the communicator on Chi Tai's waist suddenly rang. After the latter chatted with the people inside after connecting, his face turned gloomy for an instant, and he hung up the communicator. Student Zheng Mu, you may be in trouble. Zheng Mu with coffee. Is drinking coffee illegal? Seeing that he still didn't understand what he meant, Chi Tai sighed. I wonder if I can take a look at your point card. Zheng Mu directly took it out and pushed it in front of the two of them. Then, under the watchful eyes of the three, the numbers on the scorecard jumped rapidly. When I took it out, it still showed 217. After only two breaths, it suddenly became 220, followed by a wave of 231. The three of them didn't speak, and just looked at the scorecard quietly. In just five minutes, the number on it had increased by more than 50. One must know that for more than 50 points, in the central area of the bone-swallowing desert, one has to go through a life-and-death struggle, and even need the cooperation of several people to kill a monster above level 20 to get it. Um, can you tell me what trouble I have? Seeing that Jing Mu hadn't understood yet, Qi Tai also understood that the other party was not like the children of those powerful families who had already learned a lot about the assessment before participating in this assessment. Seeing Zheng Mu's confused face at this moment, Qi Tai also sighed. Student Zheng Mu, your points growth rate is too fast, almost to the point where the assessment of the first-class universities in Longhua has been held for decades, and you have never seen such a speed, so Xingqin University, together with other universities, sued you for cheating. What? Cheating? Zheng Mu was stunned by such a bizarre logic. In my previous life, I played a game where I shot my head with guns and guns, and if someone reported it as cheating, let it be. In this world of professionals, you just acted so awesome that you lost your mind, and you all said I was cheating. Then if I directly set up the main base to bombard you, wouldn't I be Tiendao's own son? Zheng Mu's face darkened. So what is the decision above? Is it to cancel my grades, or to directly deprive me of my qualifications for the assessment? Hearing Zheng Mu's obviously angry question, Qi Tai waved his hands hastily. It's not that serious. You are doing things in accordance with the laws and regulations, and you are using mechanical creations recognized by heaven. It can only be said that no mechanic has been able to go this far before you, so the above thinks that you should be restricted. Zheng Mu squinted his eyes. Qi Tai sighed. You will not get points for killing monsters with a lower level than you next, and the points gained by mechanical creations for killing monsters will become half of the original. Go to Nima. As soon as Chi Tai finished speaking, he was so angry that he got on the table on the spot. Seeing the teacup and tea set rolled to the ground, Qin Yun Lao Dao and Chi Tai were not angry at all. This matter is really a bit unreasonable. Zheng Mu clenched his fists, the first time, the first time he was so angry and lost his composure because of one thing. Even if he was rejected by Xing Qing and other universities when he signed up, it is not as exciting as it is now. He is angry. At the beginning, I was a tasteless mechanic who wanted to sign up for the assessment, but was rejected by others and he accepted it. Don't expect to be treated fairly if you have no value yourself. However, now that he has become stronger, so strong that his points directly crushed the examiners of other schools, 
he has ushered in suppression because of this? Did Southwest Military Attaché University not object? Chi Tai sighed, stretched out his two hands and made a gesture. One to nine, Southwest Military Military University is definitely stronger than Xingqing University, and there are people who can speak up, but there are too many people who ask to restrict you. Three schools. Fortunately, the four families can solve it directly with fists, and now. Jing Mu's fist was directly touched. Suddenly, Jing Mu seemed to have thought of something, and suddenly turned to look at Chi Tai. General Chi, I want to talk to General Qin from Southwest Military Military University, can you help me with this? As soon as the words fell, Chi Tai hadn't said anything, but a voice sounded faintly from behind him. Oh. Do you have something to tell me? Zheng Mu was startled by the voice behind him, and then he suddenly found out. That General Qin appeared behind him without knowing when. Seeing Zheng Mu's angry face, General Qin sighed and shook his head in shame. Sorry, we tried our best, but now the dean can't be contacted for the time being. There are a total of ten first-class professional universities in Longhua, and nine of them request restrictions on you. Zheng Mu interrupted the other party by shaking his head directly. General Qin, since restricting me has already been decided, I won't say more, but I can't just swallow this loss. I have a request, and I hope you will report it to the higher authorities. Apply. General Qin frowned. For some reason, Zheng Mu in this state gave him an extremely dangerous feeling. You say. Zheng Mu stared at each other and paused. I request that the restriction on killing people be lifted. What? This time, not to mention the General Qin in front of him who was stunned, Qin Yin Lao Dao and Qi Tai standing behind him looked at Zheng Mu at this moment as if they were looking at a lunatic. Access to kill authority? Doesn't that mean that this bone-destroying desert is to be completely reduced to a ruthless arena for the geniuses of the Dragon Kingdom? Zheng Mu stared at General Qin in front of him. I know that my request is actually not too much. Thirty years ago, the assessment of first-class universities required signing a life-and-death agreement, but it has been changed now. I agree with restricting my points, but if I were a professional and a candidate for the Southwest Military Military University, I should be a strong player in this examination field, but because of your incapable of 4, 5, let me endure humiliation, then I can only say. Southwest Military Military University, if it is gone, it will be gone. In this way, the following words came out of Zheng Mu's mouth. It can be seen how angry he is at this moment. General Qin frowned when he heard Zheng Mu's disdainful tone towards Southwest Military Military University, but he had nothing to say. After deliberating for a while, he finally spoke. You have to know that if the killing authority is lifted, you will not only become a hunter in this desert, but also a prey, and the possibility of being a prey is even greater. Zheng Mu smiled coldly. Life and death are determined by destiny, wealth and honor are in the sky, this is the real reason why I like this world. The two looked at each other, and for a moment, General Qin felt as if he saw a fierce beast that was desperately breaking free from its shackles. For a short time, he had a terrifying thought. The young man in front of him who was judged by He Guang's rationality may not be like the impression he gave. This rational guy is locked up deep in his heart, but he is a complete madman. There was silence for a long while, under the nervous gaze of Qin Yun Old Daoist and Qi Tai. General Qin finally nodded. I will use the power from above. After General Qin left, Qi Tai and Qin Yun did not dare to stay any longer, and their hearts were all in a mess. Think of what Zheng Mu and they revealed just now, the level of this base car. The two of them have already realized that if things go wrong next time, this year's first-class university assessment may be bloodshed. Senior Qin Yun, when you were less than 20th level, do you think that with your S-level occupation, you can compete with Red's hero-level mechanical creation? In Huangsha City, Qin Yun Old Daoist, who had just landed his sword, sighed faintly after hearing this question. General Qi, it won't be where it is now. You still think that a mechanic is an A-level profession? Chapter, 60 General Qi, it won't be where it is now. You still think that a mechanic is an A-level profession? Seeing that Chi Tai still didn't understand. Old Qin Yun sighed. 
Instead of answering directly, he asked an unrelated question. General Chi, in your opinion, should SS-level professionals be the strongest professionals? Chi Tai nodded without thinking. I have never heard of the existence of occupations beyond the SS level. Qin Yun old man shook his head, if SS level professionals are the strongest, then why do they also die? Qi Tai still didn't understand what the other party wanted to express. Old Qin Yun shook his head. If great success is lacking, its use will not be harmful. There is no perfect thing in the world, and there has never been a perfect career. At best, there are different advantages at different stages. However, in my opinion, the things that really have obvious flaws should be the most precious in the world. Qin Yun Lao Dao turned his head and glanced at the huge military villa standing quietly outside Huangsha City. After all, the more obvious the defect is, the more perfect it will be after making up for it, the closer it will be to a great success. Old man, I have heard people say more than once that the flaws of a mechanic are too huge, so huge that the A-level profession recognized by the heavens is not even comparable to an ordinary D-level lifelike occupation. General Qi, now look at this little friend Jingmu, can you see any flaws about mechanics from him? Qi Tai was stunned, and turned his head to look at Zheng Mu, who was sitting quietly on the roof, wondering what he was thinking. Thinking about it carefully, it seems that it is really what Qin Yun said. After Zheng Mu solved the big problem that the blueprints of mechanical creations were not recognized by heaven, it seems that the mechanics really couldn't find the slightest weakness. HP and MP are bound to the mechanical creation, as long as the mechanical creation does not die, Zheng Mu, the mechanic, will not die. There is no need to keep a certain distance from the summoned object like summoner, otherwise the summoned object will disappear. Where is Zheng Mu? The T-800 has been run for more than 10 kilometers, and there is no sign of functional limitation. There are many places that Qi Tai can't think of at all. After thinking about it for a while, after Zheng Mu made up for the shortcomings of a mechanic, the potential contained in Zheng Mu seems that 09 is really not comparable to any S-level occupation, or even an SS-level occupation. After all, these occupations have more powerful skills and more terrifying attack power. It seems that the upper limit of growth is the limit of their skill tree. And what about Jing Mu? It seems that the so-called upper limit of a mechanic is completely determined by the terrifying mechanical creations he can create. And think carefully about what terrifying mechanical creations Jing Mu can create in the future. Qi Tai couldn't figure it out, but just because Jing Mu had just awakened for two months, he created such a terrifying mechanical creation that was rated as Red Brave by Heavenly Dao. The mechanical creations created in the future will only be more terrifying. Thinking of this, Tai couldn't help shivering. To a certain extent, the other nine first-class universities in Longwa besides the Southwest Military Military University have definitely provoked this existence with terrifying potential. Thinking of Zheng Mu's anger today, he dared to directly ask for the killing limit to be turned on. In the future, this matter will definitely not be exposed by him so easily. Hey, it's very good. If you are robbed of the first place, you will be robbed. Yu Xingqin University has also been the first in the assessment for so many years. How about the other time? Qi Tai shook his head, feeling a little pity for the future Xingqin University. On the top floor of the base, looking at Zheng Mu who was clearly in a bad mood, the Red Queen stood beside him silently. This world is like this. Whether it is the world of professionals today or the world I lived in, it is cruel. People who lack strength and have no bargaining chips in their hands can only become bargaining chips in the hands of others. Zheng Mu didn't speak. Seeing Zheng Mu like this, the Red Queen hesitated for a moment before stepping forward lightly, wrapping the other's body into her arms with both hands. This body can't feel any too real touch, however, the Red Queen is still inexplicably nervous. After all, she is not an intelligent life in the true sense. She should be regarded as a human being in the first place, but she became a ghost after death, and was bound by the machine nest to become the current Red Queen. But she is still a real human being psychologically and ideologically. Zheng Mu felt the soft body of the other party. The physical touch of the body felt a little fake, but the touch of two hearts was the most real. 
After being silent for a while, Jing Mu finally uttered a sentence firmly and firmly, which he will definitely carry through to the end in the future. From now on, I will never let something like a marionette happen to me like today. Absolutely not. On the other side, after General Qin left Cheng Mu's side, he quickly rushed to Shindu, the Dragon Kingdom, through the teleportation formation in Huangsha City. The campuses of ten first-class universities in Longhua are all located here. After entering the campus of Southwest Military Military University, General Qin came to his office quickly and picked up a special phone. Hey, old principal, there is one thing I really need your help with. After he described the situation he was facing now, there was a long silence on the phone. Finally, a voice came from Yo-Yo. Xiaoji, back then you dared to go to the gate of the local university to fight because of a Japanese professional who molested your classmate. For this reason, we old guys are so eager to fight with that side directly, uh -huh. General Qin was silent for a while, and the voice on the phone continued. I don't know if you have forgotten about it, but I, an old bone, still remember it very clearly. This is one of the reasons why I admired you so much back then. Unfortunately, that was back then. Hearing the words of the old man, there was no severe reprimand, let alone scolding. However, Qin General Qin Ji became nervous in an instant. Teacher, I. He wanted to explain something, but the old man's voice on the phone interrupted him. Think about it, back then you chose a poor and white military officer in the southwest who faced many difficulties, so even if we old fellows tried our best, we would have to kill you and those Japanese slaves. Now, isn't that little baby in your mouth also the southwest military officer who chose a difficult time? He is now just like you back then. He is clearly a person, but he dares to stand in front of so many people and shout out his fierce fighting spirit if we didn't help you back then, would you have done it for us? Do you feel that your persistence is not worth it? Xiao Ji, you are the elite trained by my Southwest Military Military University, the mainstay of the Dragon Kingdom, and even a soldier. Follow your own heart, with us old guys around, the Southwest Military Officer's heaven will not change. After hanging up the phone, General Qin, who had always looked resolute outside, was already in tears at this moment. The next day. When Zheng Mu told Kai Xinkuan and Ling Bingyue who had come back about the restrictions on him. Kai Xinkuan immediately slapped the table and it exploded. Why? Isn't this bullying? The mechanical creation was created by you yourself, and it is recognized by the Tao of Heaven. Even the experience given by the mechanical creation to kill monsters is given to you in full. For you. Isn't this fucking unbearable to lose? Different from Kai Xinkuan's fury, Lin Bingyue on the side also frowned, but looked at Zheng Mu worriedly. Do you have any plans? Zheng Mu took a deep breath and let it out slowly. Staring at the two of them. I have already applied to the Southwest Military Military University to lift the killing restriction for this assessment. Hearing this, the expressions of Kai Xinkuan and Lin Bingyue both changed slightly. Obviously taken aback by Zheng Mu's boldness. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Zheng Mu didn't think about this question. Maybe it is necessary to overthrow all the candidates except the Southwest Military Military University, maybe it is not enough to just get down on them, or he himself does not know how far he has to do to be able to make his thoughts clear. Bingyue, Ji Kuan, I'm not happy anymore, as long as these unlucky guys can make me happy, I'll let them go. On the side, Kai Xinkuan saw Zheng Mu in this state, and immediately patted his chest without hesitation. Boss, let me just say a word. We grew up together since we were young. Although we were not born in the same year, the same month, and the same day, I, Kai Xinkuan, have the guts to accompany you to die in the same year, the same month, and the same day. Isn't it Guba Xingqing University? These guys who look down on people with a dog's eyes have trouble with us when they were in Yuntong City. They have long been disliked by them. Sanqing University is targeting us, and other universities want to join in the fun. Then fight. Listening to Kai Xinkuan's impassioned and passionate words, Zheng Mu was even amused by the other party. The originally gloomy face eased a little, smiled and punched the opponent's chest. How the hell didn't I find out before, it turns out that it can be so hard. 
Kai Shinkuen scratched his head in embarrassment, and immediately laughed meanly. Isn't this following a boss who is awesome? Grandma, after I signed up for the Southwest military officer with you, the main line of my family also talked about my father and said how good Xingqin University is. I'm fucking following you, the boss. I have to let those short-sighted guys see that Grandpa Kai can blow them into scum. On the side, Leng Binyue looked at the two ignorant guys at the moment, and they looked like they were going to die together with the other side before they even wrote a word. However, I don't know why I saw a smile on Jing Mu's face. A faint smile appeared on her face involuntarily, but no one noticed. While waiting for news from General Qin, Jing Mu did not waste his time. Instead, the patrol eagle that was originally used to find monsters was released farther away. In just two days, most of the reference students of Southwest Military Military University have been confirmed. A pre-prepared order issued under the guise of the Southwest Military Attaché University was sent to them, and these people gathered towards the evacuation point. Zheng Mu started intensive preparations for the next big move. On the third day Zheng Mu waited for the news. Zheng Mu, who was facing the map of the area where the candidates were distributed in the bone-swallowing desert, frowned and thought, suddenly felt a sudden strengthening in his body. Open the panel, several lines of information are impressively listed. You killed the Golden Python 421, and you got 21. 6 experience points. You have upgraded, the current level is 420. You have new skills to learn. Zheng Mu's eyes moved, and he was at level 20, even if he didn't deliberately let his mechanical creations hunt high-level monsters in a targeted manner. Experience points still reached full value within 3 days. Open the skill tree. This time directly unlocked three skills. Two of them are two skills under the mechanical cell, branch. Mechanical somatic cell transformation LV1, absorb a specific mechanical creation, and according to the type of the mechanical creation, a random attribute of the user itself will be substantially improved. Computing power. Occupation, 20-50% discount for computing power enhancement. Cooldown, one use. Note, each mechanical creation can only use this skill once, absorb it once. Life Source Cell Transformation LV1, absorb a specific mechanical creation, and according to the type of the mechanical creation, a random attribute of the user itself will be substantially improved. Computing Power Occupation, 20-50% discount for computing power enhancement. Cooling Time, 1 month. No, when it comes to the profession of a mechanic, how shoddy it is. Two different skills, but the content introduction is exactly the same as Tain Yang's. The most important thing is that Zheng Mu has no way to find any customer service. After hesitating for a while, Zheng Mu chose to study directly. If there is something wrong with 953, just try it out directly. Anyway, the subordinate skills under the skill branch of mechanical cell, are all self-enhanced. After thinking about it, I recruited two T-800s. Zheng Mu cast the skill mechanical body cell transformation, directly on one of them. The next moment, under Zheng Mu's shocked gaze, the T-800 in front of him actually melted into a liquid, and then without waiting for his reaction, he was wrapped up and lifted up. Along with a strange feeling of being invaded by a foreign body, Zheng Mu felt shamefully enriched. Successful transformation of mechanical body cells, absorbing target bionic humanoid combat robot T-800. Congratulations on obtaining, strength attribute 50, agility attribute 50. What the hell? This skill is used in this way. Feeling the combat power of my body, it is directly more than twice as strong as before. What Qing Mu couldn't wait for was to use life source cell transformation, on another T-800. After a while of the same process, this time, Zheng Mu only felt that his whole body became much more relaxed, and his brain reaction seemed to be more agile. At the same time, his vision became sharper. Successful transformation of the source of life cells, absorbing the bionic humanoid combat robot T-800. Congratulations on obtaining, constitution attribute 50, mental power attribute 20. Zheng Mu couldn't wait to open his personal panel. Name. Zheng Mu. Occupation, A-Level Mechanic. Level, 420025W. 
HP 5500-5500. MP 400-400. Computing power, 290440. Strength, 94. Agility, 93. Constitution, 95. Skills, Combat Analysis IV-3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV-3, Firepower Reset LV-3, Ordnance Transformation LV-3, Computing Power Enhancement LV-3, Mechanical Cell. LV-3, Nanomagnetic Field Scanning LV-3, Module Seal Cutting IV-1, Ghost Step 3, Biological Scanning LV-1, Nanomechanical Wave IV-1, Mechanical Somatic Cell Transformation IV-1. Life Source Cell Transformation V1 Mechanical Creation, Transformers Base, Transformers Optimus Prime, Liquor 40, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-838, 3D Area Handle Made 2, Patrol Hawk 500 Looking at my 4-dimensional attributes, there are 3-dimensional attributes that exceed 90 points. Zheng Mu's whole expression suddenly became excited, and the corners of his mouth grinned in a dangerous arc, revealing his sharp white teeth. Now, our proud sons of heaven will suffer old crimes. Finally, Mu looked at the last activated skill. Core Tactics LV1, you can share some mechanic skills with all your own mechanical creations in the area within a specific range, current coverage, 1 km. Computing Power Occupation, 10-50% discount for computing power enhancement. Cooling Time, None. Chapter 61. Core Tactics LV1, you can share some mechanic skills with all your own mechanical creations in the area within a specific range, current coverage, 1 km. Computing Power Occupation, 10-50% discount for computing power enhancement. Cooling Time, None. See this third newly unlocked skill. Zheng Mu was taken aback for a moment, and then revealed a look of ecstasy. Able to share some of his mechanic skills with mechanical creations within one kilometer. Zheng Mu had already thought of the power of this skill in an instant. First. There are not many skills that can be used to assist in combat. Battle analysis allows him to make judgments on the surrounding attacks one second in advance and make an early response. And nanomagnetic field scanning can directly break all assassin stealth and stealth skill effects. This is definitely a very powerful skill in the game. In addition to these two skills that can be used in combat, Zheng Mu was also surprised to find out. Golden Hand Biological Scan and Nano Mechanical Wave These three skills used in mechanical manufacturing can also be displayed through mechanical creation in the future. However, the cooling time of the skill still has to be counted on him. However, this can also provide some convenience to a large extent. Hee hee, now there is something to play with. Zheng Mu sneered, and without hesitation, he chose to study directly. He was already fully sure of the next crazy action, but now he suddenly rose to level 20. Three skills are unlocked. It made him more confident. I can't wait to let those candidates from other schools experience the dangers of the tasteless profession of mechanics. It is not just Zheng Mu who is preparing for the next action. Leng Binyue and Kai Shinkuan also used the experience points that were originally intended to be used for upgrading to upgrade some of their own skills. It was the second day that Jing Mu reached level 20. The point card that was originally used to record points suddenly heard a sound. Ding ding. The assessment rules have been changed, and the assessment rules have been changed. After being decided by the assessment office, the highest confirmation will be submitted. This year's first-class university assessment site rules will be adjusted, and the restriction on not being able to kill people will be lifted. By killing, you can plunder the points of other referees. Candidates who voluntarily surrender and admit defeat, activate the defensive charm, no one can continue to attack, and those who violate it will be handed over to the professional court. The original point admission rules and the restrictions on arriving at the evacuation point in January remain unchanged. After receiving the news, it is still confirmed that the students participating in the assessment can continue to act, and the students who refuse the assessment can voluntarily give up and will be picked up by the nearest Feiyun boat. Students who give up this first-rate university assessment can participate in a specially established second-rate university assessment project under the arrangement of the education department. 
There was a click, accompanied by a sharp sword cry. A huge desert centipede, at least seven or eight meters long, was decapitated with a single sword. Gu Ming, an S-level professional wine swordsman, was too late to be happy, and frowned slightly when he heard the voice from the point card on his body. Young Master Gu, such a big adjustment has been made suddenly in the assessment. This kind of situation has never been encountered before. Yes, do you want to continue participating? This is directly allowed to kill. I to be honest, I want to quit a little bit. If Mr. Gu hadn't helped me before, I'm afraid I've been beaten by that guy Wang Long to quit now. If it's allowed to kill me. He heard the chattering of a few examiners who were less capable around him. Gu Ming didn't say anything, but chose to continue directly. Even if there is a risk of death, Gu Ming has good confidence in his own strength. On the other side, S-level professional Huang Feng Mage Sang Luo heard the news on the scorecard, but he was not surprised, but delighted. Ha ha ha, I really deserve that I, Sang Luo, is well developed. Now, I can use several skills without any scruples. The first place in this assessment must be my Sang Luo's. A man with long hair, but wearing a mage robe, dressed like an artist. After laughing out loud, he suddenly turned his head and smiled at the little brothers behind him who had been following him. So, are you going to hand over your point cards yourself, or should I do it? On the ranking list, the S-level professional curse wizard Jiang Lan Lan, who ranked 8th and 9th respectively, and the S-level professional spirit guide Gu Feng formed a team at this moment. Hearing the information on the point card, the two looked at each other, both showing strong incomprehension. Little ant, why is killing people suddenly allowed? Do you want to? There is not much difference in age between the two, but in terms of seniority, Jiang Lan Lan is Gu Feng's aunt. Hearing this, Jiang Lan Lan, who was haunted by two ferocious ghosts behind her, let out a coquettish snort and raised her head. What are you afraid of? My aunt and nephew, I curse mage for being invincible in both mental and physical attacks. Even your psychic guide can summon several elemental spirits. Why is your magic attack full? Hearing this, Gu Feng, who was obviously not assertive, nodded immediately. Although my little aunt caused trouble all day long, her mind was much more flexible than her own. Before they came here to participate in the assessment, his father had explained to him that if there was anything, he would be kind to my little aunt, even if my little aunt said to give up the assessment directly, he would carry it out. However, although the S-level professionals were a little surprised and incomprehensible about this sudden change, they all had strong confidence in their own strength. They all chose to continue the assessment. And the A-level professionals basically all chose to participate in the assessment. Although there is a risk of death, let them choose to go to a second-rate university in such a desperate way. That's really hard for them to accept. At worst, if they meet someone who is really not an opponent, they just activate the defensive charm and admit defeat. However, in the face of such a sudden change, there are still many people who choose to give up on the spot. I, I won't participate. I just want to try my luck. If I enter a first-class university as a B-level professional, I will definitely be able to reach a higher height, but I don't want to work hard because of this. I also gave up. The fighting power of S-level professionals is terrible. I have seen it from a distance before. The S-level beast master Wang Long directly transformed into a mammoth and caught a LV-25 the monster trampled like crazy, and the monster turned into a pulp on the spot. Give up, I'll go with you too, hey, the assessment has already started why do you still change the rules halfway? Let's slip away. Anyway, if I leave at this time, I can choose a second-rate university. As a B-level professional, I can basically make steady progress. Above the sky, today's Feiyun boats are extremely busy, one after another keeps going down to pick up people. Huangsha City, in a huge conference hall. At this moment, representatives of all first-class universities are sitting here. However, the faces of these people are extremely ugly. Lu Weiqi, vice president of Xingqing University, stared at General Qin in front of him. Qin Ji, are all of you Southwest military officers crazy? You dare to ask for such a forceful contact with the killing limit. Do you know what will happen if you do this? You are going to cause disaster. You are finished. 
you Southwest military officers will be finished with you. On the side, Liang Jindong, the vice president of Beiwu University, also had a gloomy face and snorted coldly. It's probably the last struggle of a lunatic. It's ridiculous to really think that this will hinder our enrollment. No matter how small our number is, it will be much stronger than your Southwest Military Military University. Hee <laughs> hee, there are only more than 2,000 examiners in total. I don't know if you can keep half of them after you are messing around like this. Hearing this, representatives from other third-rate colleges shook their heads and laughed. Half. President Liang is afraid that this year's Southwest Military Military University is overestimated. In this year's enrollment, not to mention that there is no S-level professional, even if it is an A-level professional, it does not account for one-tenth of it. There are so many B-level professionals, I'm afraid they have already regretted choosing their broken ship. Now that they can run, how many people do you think can be left? However, in the face of these taunts and scolding, Qin Ji seemed to be a different person at this moment, with a ferocious smile on his face that he had never seen before. What? Scared? Joke. Lu Weiqi scolded with staring eyes. Are we afraid of your mere Southwest Military Military University? Just relying on your A-level professionals with three or two kittens. Qin Ji nodded. Yeah, just relying on our A-level professionals with three or two kittens, since Principal Lu Weiqi said he is not afraid of us, why did he break his leg a few days ago to restrict our examinee Jingmu? Those who didn't know thought that your wife ran away with someone and evacuated your house, leaving only a green hat for you. Immediately, behind Qin Ji, several generals from the Southwest Military Military University in military uniforms laughed loudly. Seeing this, Lu Weiqi's lungs were about to explode. However, seeing the playful gazes behind Qin Ji staring at him, he could only grit his teeth and snort coldly. Let's wait and see. I really think that shit mechanic is a treasure, even if he made a mechanical creation, he is just a mere A-level professional. In our Xingqin University, there are only four S-level candidates. What do you Southwest military officers use to fight us? As he spoke, Lu Weiqi ignored the persuasion of everyone and left the meeting angrily. The military general standing behind Qin Ji showed a little serious expression on their faces after the other party left. Staring at the huge light curtain on the wall of the conference room in front of him. At this moment, on the top, a column of numbers is jumping rapidly. 3,000, 4,000, 8,000 in just half an hour, the number has jumped to more than 10,000. It's unbelievable, it's unbelievable, as professionals, there are so many people who choose to give up because they are afraid of death before they meet their opponents. If these people follow the previous rules, I am afraid that many of them will be able to pass the examination and enter first-class universities. A general frowned, his face extremely ugly. These people who graduated from first-class universities will have good contacts and relationships at that time, and those who are trained from first-class universities such as Xingqin must have good strength. However it is estimated that they are just some parallel imports that can only play against the wind. On the side, Qin Ji nodded. In these years, our exploration and advancement in those large monster areas has always been delayed or delayed due to various reasons. Even if we finally launched a large-scale operation, the gains are incomparable to the sacrifices we paid. It turns out that these wine bags and rice bags have cultivated so many embroidered pillows for us. In the time it takes to speak, the number of people who directly choose to give up has risen again. At the same time, in a certain cloud-shrouded unknown space, a person with closed eyes is visiting. The old man who realized something suddenly frowned. But suddenly a chuckle came from his mouth. It's not hopeless, changing at this time can always save a lot. However, a flat voice came from the side. It's a good thing to want to change, but how far you can change in the short term depends on whether the medicine you have prepared is strong enough. Zheng Mu didn't know at the moment that his madness this time made him directly enter the eyes of some top experts in the Dragon Kingdom. Right now he is busy with another matter. These days, under the contact of the patrolling eagle, there are still two zero zero Southwest Military Military University applicants, finally gathered at the base. After these people arrived, they already knew that they were tricked. What was the order from the Southwest Military Attaché University? 
They thought that the Southwest military attaché secretly wanted to give them some support in order to keep them. In the end, it turned out to be Zheng Mu, who was a candidate just like them. In the name of the school, they will be gathered here. I said, you guy, if you can't give us an explanation, I will absolutely report to the supervision office for your behavior like this today. That's right. You even tricked us into planting low-level monsters. The monsters here want to accumulate enough points for admission. It's almost as difficult as climbing the sky. You bastard is wasting all of our time. Looking at the excited crowd, Zheng Mu stood on the high roof of the base, looking at these sparse guys, a term already appeared in his mind. Unknown army. The occupation level is low, the character level is low, and the courage often comes from the size of the number of people on one's own side. At this moment, these guys who were kicked out by other first-class universities in the central area are like wild dogs, running around. After arriving at the fringe area of this bone-swallowing desert, and thinking that they had evidence of Zheng Mu's mistakes in their hands, all of them straightened up again inexplicably. Seriously, if it wasn't for these guys' head counts, this year's Southwest Military Military University would at least not be downgraded as soon as the semester started. He really doesn't like these guys at all. A bunch of idiots who don't understand the situation, but anyone with a little brain, looking at his huge base at the moment, should understand that standing in front of them can't compete against S. Level professional people. At least, it's not something they can provoke. Zheng Mu didn't speak. Li Wang's, however, at the next moment, the gate of the base under his feet suddenly opened. Crashing a piece of mechanical creation, it rushed out while everyone was stunned. In the next second, the professional standing in the front and the first to speak saw a fist zooming in front of his eyes. Boom! Ah! The latter screamed directly and flew upside down in an instant, and the surrounding professionals were also stunned. At the same time, they didn't figure out what the things that attacked them were. It is not clear why Jing Min dare not take action directly because they have more than ten times the number of people on their side. Damn! This kid is crazy. Fuck him. Eat grandpa, I will use fire rain technique. Oh. Looking at the messy scene, let alone Leng Yenmu and Kuei Shinkuan beside Mu were stunned. In Huangsha City. Seeing Zheng Mu who didn't agree with each other, he directly chose to use force to deal with these mobs. Even Qin Ji and the others looked confused. Why, why do you do this to these people? Is this kid planning to grab points from these people? Qin Ji frowned, and He Guang looked at the picture, and he was horrified and didn't know what to say. Boss, you, what are you doing? Didn't you say that you want them to accept our arrangement and bring them into the Southwest military attaché together? Kai Shinkuan looked at the various skills and attacks in front of him, and greeted everyone who was on the mechanical creation. He only felt his scalp numb, and what made him even more incomprehensible was why he just moved his hands. Zheng Mu gave him a sideways glance, and pointed to the situation below. Look at them, are they obedient and obedient? Or, do you plan to be a good man and talk to them about the overall situation and ideals in life? Kai Shinkuan turned his head and saw that the two zero zero candidates for Southwest military officer who were clearly dissatisfied with them seemed to have found an outlet after Zheng Mu took the initiative to do something. He was a different person from the way he was chased away by other candidates during the Patrol Eagle investigation before. Chapter, 62 Leng Bingyue, who had been quietly watching this scene, instantly understood what Qing Mu meant. But he also sighed and said in a speechless voice. But you should have talked to them anyway. Zheng Mu smiled lightly with a cold smile on his face. Negotiation is an activity between the strong and the strong. When the nine first-class universities jointly sanctioned me, they didn't discuss with me. They are the well-deserved strong for me today, so I accept it silently. And right now, these scumbags, in front of us, what qualifications do they have for dialogue? This was said very coldly, without the slightest sympathy at all. And the truth is, Zheng Mu and these guys really don't need to talk about affection. After all, these people, like myself, are all candidates of the Southwest Military Military University, and they are stable competitors with each other. If it weren't for the dilapidated appearance of the Southwest Military Military University, 
so few people had signed up in total, and if there was no competition for places, these 2,000 people would not stand together by themselves. Now it shows the appearance of a common enemy. But what Cheng Mu has to do at this moment is to take these wine bags and rice bags as the heads of recruits, and temporarily keep the first class grade of Southwest Military Military University. In a way, these people still owe him. In this case, let Cheng Mu stand up and talk to them in a good voice, and let these guys follow his own arrangements. He he. I don't think so. At this moment, the battle scene can only be described as lively. After all, there are 2,000 people, and anyone who is randomly pulled out is at least a B-level professional. Since Xing Mu couldn't be an S-level professional, they are only A-level, so they are naturally not cowardly at all. Facing the mechanical creations that rushed out one by one, they released their own skills. Thunder Slash Big Fireball Earthquake Spike Shield of Courage Looking at the colorful skill light effects below, Zheng Mu is not at all worried that his mechanical creations will be defeated. With these guys still occupying the superiority in numbers, no one noticed at all that more and more people fell to the ground and howled. The people behind rushed towards the front row one after another, as if they were afraid of taking a step too late, and they would not have any credit for the crusade against Zheng Mu, an unruly villain. Among the crowd, an A-level grave guard saw the timing, and suddenly threw the coffin behind him at a liquor who was killing all directions in the crowd. Ha ha ha, this monster belongs to me. Laughing, a mummy monster covered in bandages rushed out of the coffin in the next moment, and shot out its sharp claws towards the liquor. However, this guy's movements are very fast, and the speed of the liquor is even more unexpected. Pfft. As if he had expected the opponent to attack like this, the upper body of the liquor suddenly stood up. When the mummy 443 monster just broke out of the coffin in midair. A pair of sharp claws had grabbed each other's shoulders. Next moment. The candidate for the A-level Tomb Slayer profession was stunned to see that the mummy, which he had placed high hopes on, was torn in half with a click like a blank sheet of paper. The coffin fell to the ground with a bang. The liquor had already rushed in front of him. Don't want. Boom. Under the huge impact of the liquor, the ladder flew up directly, flying upside down and hitting several people, causing a lot of wailing, and at the same time, he spurted out a mouthful of old blood. The blood bar has already reached the endangered warning line. Get out of the way, priest, give me a milk. Ah, uh, I won't fight anymore, I won't fight anymore. These guys are perverts, is this a mechanic? Ah, uh, I can't stop it. In less than an hour, Zheng Mu looked at the professionals who collapsed and began to spread around after nearly half of the people were knocked over by the mechanical creation. Shook his head. The strength of these guys is much higher than he imagined. The accuracy of skill release, the cooperation of fighter planes, and the response after being close to him are all garbage. Compared with Leng Binghua and Kai Xinkuan whom he was familiar with, the difference was not even a star. Because of Zheng Mu's encouragement and pressure, the two used their fighting skills, not only the effect was outstanding, but even when they were fighting, they were also quite aesthetically pleasing. This, these guys are too watery, right? Kai Xinkuan swallowed a mouthful of saliva, and looked at the watch on his wrist. Damn it! Two thousand professionals fought with more than seventy mechanical creations under Zheng Mu's command, and they lasted for less than an hour. It means that he has lost his fighting spirit. Leng Binghua also frowned slightly. The skills of these guys have obviously not been upgraded, not to mention their low power, and when they are used by themselves, they are also not very accurate. Not to mention that long-range mage attacks can't hit the target, but will hurt people in their own camp. Warriors who are close to each other don't know how to cooperate with each other, their equipment is rubbish, and their combat awareness is like a gangster fighting on the street. Now, Leng Binghua didn't want to look any further. Thinking that these guys would successfully enter the first-class Southwest Military Military University with the help of Zheng Mu, Leng Binghua even felt that the beating was a bit light. These wastes are really a big deal. Another hour later. After paying the price of more than a dozen T-800s being damaged, Zheng Mu finally beat all the Southwest Ajek, military officer candidates to the ground. Of course, the three of them stood on a high place, 
but they saw people who were not attacked more than once, and they saw themselves lying on the ground. At the end, when the mechanical creations under Zheng Mu approached, without their hands, these people just lay on the ground obediently one by one. On the periphery of the bone-swallowing desert, the sound of wind and sand seemed so clear in the dead silence. Zheng Mu let the damaged T-800s enter the base for maintenance. Then after everyone waited in silence for five minutes. Those who were lying on the ground were still wondering what Zheng Mu was going to do. The gate of the base opened again. Boasting. Looking at the few who got the T-800 before, they stood in front of them again intact after only a short while. Among the people lying on the ground, those who claimed to have caused harm to the mechanical creation, and if their teammates were not too hot, they would definitely be able to beat Jing Mu's iron bumps to the ground, all had their eyes popped out. The hypocritical pride that had just risen in my heart shattered to the ground in an instant. Fuck, this thing can still be repaired. What kind of perverted profession is this? This is definitely not a mechanic. This is something that a weak profession can do. One person singled out so many of us, and we still lost, wow, I really want to die. Amidst the rustling discussions, these guys who were originally arrogant looked obediently at Zheng Mu and the others. Those human-shaped mechanical creations just now had guns on their bodies, but they didn't use them. In addition to those present, although everyone's blood volume has bottomed out, they have saved their lives steadily. It can be seen that Zheng Mu did not intend to kill them. It seems that if I am talking at this time, the effect should be better. Zheng Mu's flat voice, amplified by the bass under his feet, was heard by everyone present. However, after waiting for a while, no one responded. Zheng Mu shook his head. It seems that the beating is still light. As he spoke, he waved his hand, and the mechanical creature standing in front of these guys took a step forward in an instant. No, no, no. Brother, stop hitting, stop hitting, whatever you say, I was wrong. Boss, I was the one who was mean just now, brother, please don't let them do it, if you keep beating me, I'm going to die. Boss, you said, we will agree to anything. Yeah. Only then did Zheng Mu stop the next move of the mechanical creature, looking at these guys who were lying on the ground and didn't even have the courage to sit up, he revealed his plan. It's been a week since the assessment started, compared to the fact that you already know your own strength in front of other university candidates, how far can you go? Seeing everyone nodded in frustration. Zheng Mu continued talking. According to the normal results, all of you here may not be able to win enough assessment points within the specified time, so the only way to be eliminated. However, I summoned you here, naturally not to persuade you to give up early. In Huangsha City. After Qin Ji heard Zheng Mu's words, he was also stunned. What does it mean? Could it be that Zheng Mu still expects these guys, who can't even do the mechanical creation under his command, to play any role in the subsequent confrontation with other college candidates? Think about the horrible battle scene just now. In his opinion, it is better to just play alone if these people are kept by his side as support. Staying by your side is a bunch of burdens. Hey, sure enough. After all, he is an examiner of nine first-class universities, not to mention there are several S-level professionals among them. Presumably even he must try his best to find some strength at this moment. With a sound from Yuan, it seemed that Jing Mu had already seen through the purpose of calling these school examiners. However, he didn't notice it. Qi Tai and Qin Yun old man standing not far behind him looked at each other after hearing his words. The expression became weird. They already knew from Zheng Mu that his huge base was a mechanical creation of the Red Bravery class. Simply because it can change from a car to a house. They don't think that this can be rated as Red Brave by Tian Dao. That huge building must be super terrifying, even if it is a super killer that they have to deal with carefully. However, Zheng Mu told them the level of the mechanical creation, and they will not spread the word without character. At this moment, they can only quietly look at the representatives of these universities around them. Looking at these people quietly, discussing in a low voice, laughing at Jing Mu's helplessness. Laughing at the Southwest Military Attaché University's self-disruption at this moment. TSK TSK TSK, it really makes people look forward to it more and more. 
How terrifying is Red's hero-level mechanical creation? Chi Tai stood behind him with his chest folded, silently eating melons. At the same time, Zheng Mu, who was standing on the roof of the villa, finally revealed his true purpose. Looking at these unidentified candidates for the Southwest military officer. From today onwards, all of you don't need to collect points anymore, just stay honestly near the evacuation point for me, and I will snatch enough points from other people and distribute them to you at the end. Guarantee each of you. People can successfully enter the Southwest Military Military University, and all you have to do is Wait here quietly, don't go anywhere. What? Everyone was in an uproar, and some people were even more shocked and sat up in shock. When everyone heard Zheng Mu's arrogant words, they were so shocked that they didn't know how to evaluate it. They all looked at Zheng Mu and the others on the rooftop in astonishment. We don't have to do anything, he collects points for us. Did I hear wrong? After receiving a few treatments from priest, his blood volume recovered, but the A-level tomb slayer Heng Shanha, who still had a dull pain in his chest, asked the people around him stupidly. The latter has the same expression. There are a total of two zero zero of them here. They admitted that the abnormal mechanic in front of them was extremely powerful and extremely abnormal. However, that also has a limit. The two thousand of them don't need to do anything, just wait quietly, and they can collect enough points for them. What kind of project is that? What quantity is that? I've never heard of it, the boss can fly with two thousand people alone. Zheng Mu's plan has also spread to Huangsha City at this moment. Qin Ji's eyes were dull, and the expression on his face froze. But Lu Weiqi and the others who were also here were stunned for a moment, and then burst out laughing. Ha ha ha, my god, those who don't know are so fearless, look at what tiger and wolf words I have heard. Hey, I'm a young man after all. I really don't know the heights of heaven and earth at all, but to be honest, I really want to understand something. Look at the female classmate next to Zheng Mu. Just. Hearing one person's words, everyone looked at Lang Bingmu standing beside him in the picture. A beautiful woman who is exquisite enough to attract admiration, if placed in any of their universities, she must be a school beauty. However, at this moment, the other party was looking at Zheng Mu's profile carefully with an obsessed expression, and his movements were cautious, as if he was afraid of being discovered. Ha ha ha, that's how it is, that's how it is, you hot-blooded young man, understand and understand, ha ha ha, General Qin, you have to understand too. Lu Weiji's laughter was full of sarcasm and schadenfreude. As he spoke, he stepped forward and patted Qin Ji on the shoulder. The latter clenched his fists tightly. Seriously, as long as no one is watching, this old man will definitely be slapped severely by him in a sack. However, at this moment, he couldn't care about these things, and looked at He Guang who was beside him. The latter shook his head again and again, expressing that he did not know why Chu Mu would say such an unrealistic plan. In his perception, Zheng Mu is not a person who speaks freely. However, in the picture at this moment, Zheng Mu's rhetoric is really unbelievable. Seeing the silence of everyone at the Southwest Military Military University, the smiles on the faces of Lu Weiqi and others became more intense, and at the same time, they felt a little bit more disdain for Zheng Mu. After all, he is just an A-level garbage mechanic. Somehow, he picked up shit luck and made some amazing mechanical creations, and because of the loopholes in the assessment rules, he made a small splash. Now that the rules have changed, what kind of mechanics will be their opponents for those S-level professionals? And this guy, actually really regarded himself as someone, dared to say that he would lead 2,000 lying people to pass the examination of a first-class university. Lu Weiqi shook his head. Hee hee, General Qin, if you really want to accept these 2,000 candidates who are lying flat, your grades will drop directly below the third-rate standard, right? Qin Ji clenched his fists. Take a deep breath and let yourself calm down. At the same time, those few words from his teacher on the phone suddenly sounded in his mind. At this moment, the Southwest Military Military University is in the process of assessment, and can no longer do anything for Xing Mu. The only thing they can do is trust. Thinking about myself back then, I dared to single-handedly go to the Japanese professional college, threatening to overthrow all of them. 
wasn't my behavior at that time also called by many people as sensationalism? Is my original self limited by Zhang's current strength? After one question after another, Qin Ji calmed down instead. Principal Lu is still worried about your candidates. If you are really overthrown by Zheng Mu alone, according to the rules, even S-level professionals will face the possibility of not being able to enroll. The ending. Lu Weiqi curled his lips when he saw that the other party still had the intention to mock him. Hee <laughs> hee, it seems that our General Qin was also confused by this mechanic and started talking nonsense. Chapter, 63 Qin Ji ignored the cynicism of these guys on the side. Outside of Huangsha City, Zheng Mu, who finished talking about his plan, didn't intend to waste his words with these guys anymore. With the movement of his mind, the villa, which originally covered an area of two square kilometers, suddenly began to shake. The next moment, under everyone's horrified gaze, the base turned into a huge chariot with a height of four or five floors. Aye aye. Fuck. What the hell is this fucking thing? Hurry up and hide. Those examinees who were sitting or lying on the ground were like frightened rabbits, and they seemed to be revived with full blood in an instant, rolling and crawling, running towards the distance. Finally, as the transformation was over, he finally stood nervously in the distance, at a loss for what to do. They wanted to use detection techniques to detect the information of the huge metal monster in front of them, but they couldn't find anything. Accompanied by a rumbling sound, just watching helplessly, this huge monster drove towards the central area of the desert with an overwhelming momentum. Is this guy really a mechanic? Could it be that this thing is also a mechanical creation? A professional swallowed his saliva, as if he was asking himself, but also as if he was asking those around him, who, like him, also stared blankly at Cheng Mu and the others who left. Far away, those mechanical creations that beat them before, after this terrifying big guy started, they headed in a forward direction and left ahead of schedule. Like a scout who scouted beforehand. At this moment, a person seemed to have thought of something, and asked quietly. You said that he brought two zero zero of us into the Southwest Military Military University is it true? And, even if he could, why would he do it? We don't seem to be close to him. Everyone frowned again in puzzlement. However, some people seem to have thought of something. Suddenly sighed. Seeing the people around him looking towards him, Hang Shanha, the A-level tomb slayer, shook his head, already full of shame. Don't you guys still understand? Think about it, the two thousand of us were overthrown by him alone. In terms of the rules that allow killing after the current concept, how many of us do you think can it last for a month and collect enough points? Immediately, everyone shook their heads. Hung Shanha spread his hands. And then? What do you think will happen to the Southwest Military Military University, where no new recruits have been recruited? Immediately, the recent situation of the Southwest Military Military University appeared in everyone's mind. Everyone gasped. Downgrade. Hang Shanha nodded, and couldn't help but look in the direction of Zheng Mu's departure, but now his eyes are full of admiration and gratitude. Yeah, downgrade. Although I don't know why a mechanic who has always been regarded as a weakling has such a strong strength, but I confirm one thing. Hang Shanha's fist is tight. If he doesn't want to take care of the Southwest Military Military University, he doesn't need to take care of us, let us lose the chance to enter the professional college forever, and become a wild professional like those C-level and D-level professionals. Everyone was silent, ashamed emotions spread among each other. They understood that they and the others had now become the Lulu of Zheng Mu, a powerful fellow professional. No. I can't just wait here, we have more than two zero zero points how can he get so many points? Is there anyone who teamed up with me to kill monsters? We can't grab those guys with good equipment and high levels in the central area. Could it be that we can't get along in the periphery? A voice sounded from the crowd, and immediately, everyone's eyes lit up. Indeed. They couldn't get along in the central area of the bone-swallowing desert, but in order not to be downgraded to the Southwest Military Military University and to live up to Zheng Mu's good intentions, he worked hard to hunt and kill more monsters in the periphery. The accumulation of little can also reduce Zheng Mu's pressure to a certain extent. Hang Shanha also stood up immediately. That's right. 
We admit that we are not as good as others, but we absolutely cannot accept that we just sit here with peace of mind and wait for the admission qualifications sent by others. We can't beat those candidates from Xingqing University, and those candidates from Beiwu University drove us around. Don't we have a foothold in this bone-destroying desert? Brothers. Introduce your profession, and match each other. Let's form a team one by one, and fight out the sky in the periphery. Okay. That's it. I'm a B-level glory knight, and my attack power is not high, but I can resist it, and I can also activate the auxiliary aura. I am an A-level cat spirit assassin, good at taunting, fast, and can quickly attract monsters. Come, come, come to us, we have a B-level trap master here, with your ability to lure monsters, it will definitely take off. In Huangsha City. Looking at the screen, after Zheng Mu left, it seemed that some kind of fighting spirit had been activated, and everyone started to form a team on the spot, looking for monsters on the outskirts of the bone-swallowing desert and collecting points. Qin Ji's cold face finally eased. At least it hasn't reached the point where it's completely hopeless. On the side, He Guan also showed some gratified smiles on his face. He he, general, I'm right, this kid is really a very charismatic guy, he beat up all these people for a single disagreement, look, now he has managed to win their hearts. It's a good material for an officer. Qin Ji squinted at him, and had already seen through this guy's thoughts. Let's put aside your little thoughts first, we are not sure how this assessment will end right now. However, He Guang was in a hurry. General, you have also seen that Zheng Mu is really a person with great potential. Even if he loses this time, he will be defeated with great honor. What we want in Southwest Military Military University is not to be as fearless as him. Difficult people. Sufficient combat power, sufficient potential, and good leadership skills. As long as we cultivate it well, we dare not say that we will become the existence of the top ten guardian gods in the future, but at least it is a handsome talent who can stabilize one side. Qin Ji frowned. Okay, okay, if you want to be the general, do you need to talk about this kind of thing? Now, He Guang finally felt relieved. From the looks of it, General Qin would definitely not let anything happen to Zheng Mu. The other side. Master, those professionals have started to form a team to look for monsters outside. After Zheng Mu saw the screen of the patrolling eagle that was transferred out after seeing Hong, his frown was slightly stretched, and he nodded without saying anything. On the other hand, Kai Xingkuan pouted. They still have a bit of conscience. Leng Binghua looked at Zheng Mu, so where are we going next? Don't we go directly to the central area? He has already noticed that the direction of travel of the base vehicle has begun to shift. Zheng Mu smiled faintly, and motioned to the Red Queen beside him. The latter immediately waved his hand, and the next moment a light curtain map with red and blue colors appeared in front of several people. It has been about a week since the assessment started. During this time, the scope of activities of the candidates of each university has basically been fixed. Based on these trajectories, we can roughly divide the bone-swallowing desert into nine areas. As he said that, the school badges of first-class universities appeared in the light curtain, and they were respectively marked in areas of different brightness. Xinqin University and Beiwu University, as leaders among the first-class universities, occupy half of the central area respectively. As for the other first-class universities, they are located a little outside the central area. Because these candidates don't even know our existence, we can break through them one by one with peace of mind and eliminate as many candidates as possible. The patrol eagle was flying above the sky, and it was easy to report the detected position of a professional who was fighting monsters to the people in the base vehicle and the mechanical creations that were moving outside. Quick, quick, hold it back, its blood volume is running low. Brother Nyo. Hold on. I'll backstab it. Brother Ashing, Kwai Nyo, riding must hold on. In the desert, there is a giant poisonous scorpion the size of a tank, and it is fighting with a group of candidates at the moment, but the poisonous scorpion is obviously at the end of its strength. While an arrow with only fluorescent light was inserted into his body, the forelimbs of his body were also being dragged by several chains. A young man with the shape of a bull was holding a shield with a thick rock layer in front of the poisonous scorpion. 
With the assassin hidden in the dark flickering suddenly, it appeared above the head of the poisonous scorpion, and a dagger pierced into the deepest part in an instant. After a little struggle, the poisonous scorpion received the lunchbox. Ha ha ha, I got 19 points in the account. I am worthy of being a LV-24 monster. It took us so long to solve them with so many people working together. The bullish young man who was the front row tank just now wiped the sweat from his forehead with a smile. However, at this moment, a sound of breaking through the air suddenly came. The candidate who was archer among the few people suddenly looked shocked. Beware of enemy attacks. However, the next moment, a violent thunderbolt exploded among several people in an instant. Ah! Amidst the screams, the youth in the tank who was still sitting on the ground suddenly screamed. Together with a few people around him, they twitched and shook their heads. The hair exploded in an instant, and there was a burst of burnt smell. Flame Mage, the only one among the few who survived the shock grenade, had the flame shield on his body shattered instantly, just when he waved his staff and prepared to put another shield on himself. Two figures, one man and one beast, suddenly rushed out from behind the sand dunes. Boom! A huge roar came from the four-barreled shotgun in the man's hand, and the staff in his hand exploded with a single shot, and several blood holes appeared on one of Mage's arms immediately. Ah! The severe pain caused this man to lose his combat power in an instant, but the next second the muzzle of the gun was already on top of his head. Hand over your points card. The cold and blunt words made Mage have no time to think, and hurriedly shook the point card out of his pocket. The next moment, the man with the gun directly tore his defenses to shreds. Wow! Looking at a defensive cover that was suddenly propped up, Flame Mage's face suddenly turned ugly. You are eliminated by yourself. However, on the other side, his teammates who were still in a state of shock and unable to get up were also confiscated with their point cards and their defensive shields were activated at the same time. Cracking. Accompanied by the cry of a patrolling hawk. Kai Shinkuen immediately ran out of the control room excitedly. When he came back again, there were already seven or eight extra point cards in his hand. Haha, <laughs> boss, isn't this just a new product? Haha, <laughs> these guys have a lot of points, this one has more than 700 points, this one has more than 600 points, hey! This one is more than 1,500 points ah! Zheng Mu was not surprised by this, it was just the beginning. He looked at the red marks representing other university candidates on the light curtain in front of him. His eyes became dangerous. If you want to blame it, blame the school you applied for can't afford to lose. If you honestly watch me win the first place in points, I will just let you suffer a little bit and forget it. Now. Since the number of points I can get from monsters is limited, I have to find these cute little sheep. Taking the scorecards handed over by Kai Shinkuen, Zheng Mu directly touched them towards his own scorecard. Immediately, the number on Zheng Mu's scorecard soared instantly. Zheng Mu, 6,711 points. On the map, the yellow dot representing the base vehicle is heading towards the area with the most candidates for Tianji University, one of the first-class universities in Longguo. This scene was completely monitored by the Feiyun boats of various universities in the sky. Seeing that Zheng Mu turned around and went towards their people, the expression of the representative of Tianji University changed slightly. He wanted to report to his own candidates, but under the control of the supervisors, he couldn't do it at all. He could only watch Zheng Mu and the others keep advancing. On the standings, Zheng Mu's points soared rapidly, reaching the number one position in just half a day. The representative of Tianji University looked at the leaderboard in his hand with an ugly expression. Mechanic Zheng Mu, currently has 147,710 points, ranking first. Huang Feng Mage Sang Luo, currently has 4,992 points, ranking second. Beast Master Wang Long, currently has 4,773 points, ranking third. The Grudge Wizard Jiang Lan Lan, currently has 3,677 points, ranking fourth. Wine Swordsman Gu Ming, currently has 3,670 points, ranking 5th. Gu Feng, the Spirit Guide, currently has 3,550 points, ranking no. Damn it! 
The existence of this Zheng Mu is simply against the rules. The representative of Tianji University was in a hurry, and what he couldn't accept was that he was under the surveillance of Fei Yin Zhou at the moment. The base car where Zheng Mu was located, directly after reaching the central area of Tianji University, turned into a huge building again as before. This guy is obviously planning to carry out a devastating settlement of the candidates in their area. The 140.00 points on the leaderboard is the result of Zheng Mu's mechanical creations attacking hundreds of candidates. Among them, only their Tianji University candidates accounted for more than 60%. The situation of Tianji University was seen by the representatives of other schools. Looking at Zheng Mu's score that could not be surpassed, everyone frowned deeply. Principal Lu, are we just watching helplessly as they defeat us one by one? The representative of Tianji University anxiously found Lu Weiqi, but at this moment, Lu Weimeng was suffering and could not tell. Beside him, a familiar figure stood impressively. It was Qin Ji with a playful smile on his face. He he, Director Wang, I know you're in a hurry, but don't worry, student Jing Mu's current behavior doesn't violate any rules at all, and it can even be said that he has overplayed his hand. Sound. Qin Ji pointed to the light curtain in front of him, on which was a team of T-800s and liquors, encircling and suppressing a team of Tianji University candidates. Our classmate Jing Mu has the ability to kill them, but in the end we just snatched their point cards. If President Lu dares to step on the ground with the century-old face of your first-class university, you can continue to protest at it. Looking at the two with ugly faces, Qin Ji's mood could no longer be described as beautiful. At this moment, it seemed that he had become the Lu Weiqi who was chattering around him and mocking him with all kinds of words. Principal Lu, if the backstage is tough, just ask the above to stop Jing Mu's point system, hey, let him watch your people get points for killing monsters, let him watch your people grab points from others, let him only be able to just watch, ha ha ha. Lu Weiqi's lungs were about to explode at this moment, and he asked dissatisfiedly to the supervisors on the side. Why Jing Mu was able to find other candidates and monsters in the desert so accurately, haven't you found out the reason yet? Chapter, 64 Lu Weiqi was obviously a little annoyed, even though Qin Ji was by his side, he still started to provoke Jing Mu's problems. However, the voice just fell. The inspectors didn't say anything, but Qin Ji laughed. What are you laughing at, General Qin? If I remember correctly, old Daoist Qin Yun and General Qi in Huangsha City seemed to have contacted the candidate Jing Mu before. Did you provide him with some kind of support secretly? Otherwise, how could he easily find the candidates scattered everywhere in such a huge area like the bone-swallowing desert? Hearing this, people from Tianji University also echoed. Yes, this is obviously a problem. Even if we want to check the position of our candidates, we need to operate and locate it ourselves. The mechanical creation under Zheng Mu's hands is like opening the eyes of the sky. That's right, there's definitely something wrong with that mechanic. General Qin, Southwest Military Military University can't operate in such a black box. This is an assessment site. Let's not say that it is meaningless for you to cheat and cheat. This in itself is against the rules. The traces of cheating are so obvious. Take a quick look, the mechanical creations in these places have obviously discovered our candidates again. This time there are seven of us candidates, and his mechanical creations converged from several places. So shameless. Listening to these people's gossip, they can't wait to turn the matter of Zheng Mu's cheating from their subjective conjecture into an established fact on the spot. However, Qin Ji smiled instead of anger at the moment. It really opened my eyes. The management of a first-class university turned out to be some trash who hoped that their opponents would cheat in order to keep their own rankings. Qin Ji made a casual move, and immediately a flying eagle with a metallic luster appeared in his hand. Throw it directly into the hands of Lu Weiqi in front of you. Hee hee, keep your dog eyes wide open, don't just catch a 410 thing that you don't understand, and just bite it casually, otherwise, our Southwest Military Military University can teach those mad dogs abroad a lesson. Can also smash your teeth. Everyone immediately threw a probing technique at the eagle. The next moment, everyone fell silent after seeing Fei Ying's attributes. Name, Patrol Eagle. 
Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Grade, White Common. Durability, 50-50. Defense Power, 5. Skill 1, Eagle Eye can accurately detect the target below at an altitude of more than 800 meters. Skill 2, Bird's Nest, link the surrounding patrol eagles, build a high-altitude reconnaissance network, and give feedback on real-time coordinate information. A white common level creation, Zheng Mu has no intention of hiding information. When General Qin sent someone to ask some doubts about his battle, he directly gave the other party a patrol eagle. As long as there are materials for this thing, he can make a lot of it. This, this small white common level mechanical creation, actually has such a great function. Lu Weiqi and the others turned pale. Now it is true that there is nothing wrong with Zheng Mu. They didn't cheat at all, it's just that they, who were already in the Feiyin boat, never thought of except that they are monitoring every move below in the sky. Zheng Mu even used this kind of thing to completely monitor the situation of all candidates. Suddenly, Director Wang of Tianji University seemed to have thought of something, suddenly raised his head, looked at a light curtain in front of him, and his face changed drastically in the next moment. Not good. This guy is planning to kill our candidates. Bang! 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 In the desert, more than a dozen figures were running wildly, and while running, they still turned their heads to look at the things chasing them behind them. Damn it, what the hell is this? Don't talk about it. Run quickly, these things that look exactly the same, you can't find any information using probing techniques. They don't look like monsters. Who is willing to walk? Stop talking, save your energy and run towards the meeting point. After a week passed, the materials in the hands of many people were almost consumed. Things like food and water need to communicate with each other, so a simple settlement appears in a small oasis in the desert. Every day there will be thousands of people resting there or selling and exchanging some materials and equipment they got. It is a small market. However, what they don't know at this moment is that there are not a few people like them who are fleeing there. At this moment, behind a hidden sand dune not far from the oasis, the base vehicle has unfolded into the appearance of a building. On the light curtain in front of Zheng Mu. With the location of that oasis, Red's reaction was the most obvious, and they had gathered into an obvious group. And under the overall planning and cooperation of his mechanical creations, the surrounding candidates also gathered in the direction of the oasis. As for some people who did not escape. Naturally, it didn't take long for their point cards to appear in Mu's hands. According to what General Chi Tai told me before, last year's first-class university examination passed the point requirement of 900 points. To be on the safe side, I set it as 1000 points per person. Zheng Mu transferred the points of several point cards in his hand to his own card. Zheng Mu, 212,110 points. The two ten zero zero points, if placed on the individual in the competition, is definitely one of the few existences in the previous assessments. However, in Zheng Mu's eyes, this only represents 21 passing places. Sure enough, such a hunting wave of collection, although the security is much higher, but the speed is too slow after all. Zheng Mu has not forgotten that besides collecting more than 20 million points for poverty alleviation, he also needs to give himself, Kai Xinkuan, Leng Bingyue and others a good ranking. After all, if you can get the top 10, the school will have additional rewards. After adding the red hero level blueprint that the system will give me. Damn it, robbery is the most promising. Zheng Mu muttered, but at this time Kai Xinkuan walked in with several large storage bags. Boss, I've got everything you want. Zheng Mu nodded. As the operation expanded, he naturally needed more mechanical artifacts. Although the two mechanical creations, T-800 and Liquor, are limited by the cooling time of Zheng Mu Golden Hand, and the required materials, they cannot be assembled on a large scale. Zheng Mu has not forgotten his other skills. Bioscanning Gan Nanomechanical Wave There are a lot of activities outside of the mechanical creations these days, Zheng Mu is not idle, and uses the mechanical creations to cast mechanical scanning on the surrounding low level monsters. Although there are very few useful things in the white common level blueprints obtained, most of them are mechanical creations that can be used as exquisite ornaments. 
However, Zheng Mu is not completely wiped out. Name, Bomb Beetle. Attack Power, 100. Skill 1, Sandland can carry out activities underground in the desert, approaching the target silently. Skill 2, Explosion, detonate itself, causing a lot of damage to targets within the explosion range. Disposable things, however, are low in cost and easy to manufacture, and the materials can be found almost everywhere in this desert. While checking the materials here, Lang Binyue came back with the same storage backpack. I wiped out all those worm nests, and the explosions in the surrounding area are now considered extinct. Hearing Lang Binyue's words, Zheng Mu immediately laughed. Not bad, not bad, Aunt Qin is right, our Binyue is really capable. Lang Binyue's face was stained with a blush, but she rolled her eyes and said nothing. When he came outside the base, Zheng Mu dumped all these things out. Looking at the densely packed objects, Zheng Mu waved his hand casually. The next moment, under the amazed gaze of Leng Binyue and the others, the materials on the ground disappeared, replaced by a thousand white common level exploding beetles. This is why Zheng Mu used all the experience during this period to upgrade biological scanning and nano mechanical wave. Otherwise, only 100 of these bomb beetles can be produced in one day's cooling time. Bioscanning LV3, after using it, you can scan the target creature whose own level is reduced by 10, and there is a 30% chance to obtain the blueprint of mechanical creation related to the creature. Cooling time, 3 hours. Computing power occupation, 20-50% discount for strengthening. Nano Mechanical Wave 4-3. It can transform white common grade materials in batches, and transform them into mechanical components of the corresponding grade at one time. It can transform no more than 1-0-0 targets each time. Cooling time, 1 day. Computing power occupation, 20-50% discount for strengthening. Help. Help. Candidates from Tianji University accounted for more than 70% of the Oasis Bazaar, and as more and more people were chased here, it immediately attracted everyone's vigilance. Although there is no use of force in the oasis, it has become the tacit rule of everyone here. However, there are some people who plan to take a slant and try to outrage others if Bao Buki is not complete. Brother, look over there. The only S-level candidate of Tianji University this year, the wizard shooter Wu Chungang looked in the direction his sister pointed. That is, I saw a few strange things appearing on the sand dunes at the edge of the oasis. There is no investigation information, at least not a monster, it seems to be a profession similar to a puppeteer. Wu Xuechen said a few words, but she had already made a certain analysis. Brother Gang, these guys snatched our point cards as soon as they came out. Many of us failed to escape, and they forcibly took away the point cards and used defensive symbols. The same is true here, besides the humanoid monster, there is also the metal beast. They are very fast, and their strength is something that even the 20th level warrior among us can't handle. Hearing everyone's narration, Wu Chuangang's brothers and sisters looked serious. These things are obviously made by one person, so if these people can escape here, I am afraid. While the two were thinking about it, three figures walked out slowly from the sand dunes outside the oasis. There are a lot of people, it seems that this time there will be a lot of gains. Zheng Mu smiled faintly, holding the Holy Land Demon Wolf, guns in his hands, and beside him, Ling Bingyue and Kai Xingkuan were also ready to fight. Boss, you. Are you sure you want to fight these guys with us? You're a mechanic. Kai Xingkuan whispered worriedly, but Zheng Mu smiled lightly. Then let's have a big comparison in a while. The appearance of the three of them immediately attracted the attention of everyone in the oasis. Are all the puppets around here yours? A female voice came, and Zheng Mu turned his head to look, and saw a group of people rushing towards this side. Seeing their vigilant and searching eyes, Zheng Mu chuckled. He looked at the young man in the lead. S-level professional elf shooter Wu Chun Gang. This year there were only a few S-level professionals, Zheng Mu naturally recognized each other at a glance. Hee hee, let me introduce myself, my name is Zheng Mu, a candidate of Southwest Military Military University, um, A-level mechanic. The purpose of coming to you this time is very simple, hand over the scorecards of all of you, 
and withdraw from the assessment by yourself, so that you can save yourself a lot of suffering. The scene was silent for a few seconds. Then a burst of laughter suddenly broke out. Ha ha ha. Could it be that this kid was scared stupid by the monsters in the bone-swallowing desert? Just three people, you actually want us to hand over our point cards? Are you out of your mind? Or do you think we are all stupid too? Wu Chuangong's brother and sister also frowned. Are you kidding me? Zheng Mu shrugged, he just knew it would be this effect. The next moment, with a thought, in the soil under the oasis, there was a sound of smiling friction, just the effort of breathing, and the beetles that no one noticed, came and went. It has crawled out of the soil. I gave you a chance. Zheng Mu smiled ferociously. Boom! The dense explosions, like brilliantly blooming red flowers, instantly enveloped most of the people present. Ah! Fuck! What? Amid the screams and chaos of the explosion, Zheng Mu and the others rushed into the crowd without hesitation, and the T-800s and liquors around the oasis also joined the battle one after another. Wu Chuangang's face was extremely ugly, and a green wind barrier wrapped himself and his sister Wu Xuechen in it. That's why they didn't get blasted to open the defensive cover like those people around them. Brother. Be careful. Suddenly, Wu Xuechen exclaimed, and a metallic sound came. Looking back, it was the beautiful girl who was standing with Xing Mu before, holding a long knife and killing them in front of them with a biting cold air all over her body. Wu Wan, seven an emerald green flute in Xu Qian's hand resisted with difficulty. However, at the next moment, he was kicked by Lang Bingyue, and the long knife in his hand chopped several times. Lang Bingyue's sword light is sharp, and his moves go straight to the vital point. Knowing the existence of the defensive talisman, he didn't consider the factor of retracting force at all. When the skill was released, a piece of ice crystals fell to the ground in an instant. As for the other side, Kai Shinkuan's fighting style was extremely wild. Send send send. The rifle in his hand magically turned into a multi-barreled Vulcan cannon after using the skill heavy fire support. Facing the dense crowd, they launched firepower frantically. Looking at the other party's excited look, he looked like a free warrior. Zheng Mu moved dexterously, walking among the dense crowd with two guns in hand. The chaos caused by the explosion made him an elegant killer in the crowd. A professional ran into him in a panic, and before the other party could say anything, the muzzle of the gun had already been stuffed into the other party's mouth. Bang bang bang. After a few bullets, the protective cover on his body was activated, and Zheng Mu directly kicked the opponent aside. The huge power made the opponent wear a defensive cover, like a large bowling ball in the crowd. Ah! Here he is. Kill. Didi. The sharp sirens suddenly sounded on all the Feiyun boats above the bone-swallowing desert. Some of the eliminated candidates who were on the Feiyun boat with frustrated faces suddenly heard the nervous shouting of the surrounding staff. Not good. Coordinates XX, YY, there are a lot of elimination signals. The number is 800. Not worthy. Still going up. However, at this moment, some people have already discovered the tragic situation in the coordinate place in advance. In other words, they have been paying attention. Director Wang of Tianji University couldn't control his roar anymore. Quick. Rescue. Go to the rescue. Chapter, 65. Call out. In the oasis, from the sudden outbreak of the battle, it developed in the worst direction at a rhythm that the candidates here could not understand at all. At this moment, after experiencing the chaos at the beginning, a large number of people were eliminated directly on the bomb beetle that Jing Mu secretly ambushed, and the rest of the elite, although they were all in a mess. But reluctantly launched a counterattack. A sharp arrow saw the sound of piercing through the air, wrapped in a strong impact. It hit Jing Mu's back. However, Jing Mu seemed to have eyes on his back, as if he had been prepared for it, and his body was lightly turned to one side. The sharp arrow directly blasted a small crater on the ground, but what surprised Wu Chun Gang was that the muzzles of the double guns in Jing Mu's hands were already aimed at his head. Bang bang. The dense barrage beat him back steadily. 
the defensive skills that are used urgently will be exhausted in just the blink of an eye. Just when Wu Chungang used his elf shooter skills to move and dodge quickly at twice the speed of his own attributes, the two guns in Jing Mu's hands seem to be locked with tracking. Between jingling. Every time he can attack the bow and arrow in his hand. Both sides are shooters, even Wu Chungang is still an S-level shooter in his profession. However, in this duel, they were directly suppressed by Jing Mu. Are you really a mechanic? Until an A-level defensive auxiliary occupation stood in front of him, Wu Chun finally got a chance to breathe just now. Wu Chuangong's question made Jing Mu smile slightly. Right here, a roar came from behind Jing Mu. Go to hell, kid. I saw a man in heavy armor wielding an exaggeratedly shaped broadsword, slashing at Jing Mu's head. Wu Chuangong's pupils shrank, and a look of joy flashed in his eyes. He knew that person, a level executioner was a kind of augmented profession of heavy infantry, and his strength was among the best among ordinary warriors. Wu Chungang was sure that Zheng Mu would never be able to dodge such a close-range attack like before. However, what made him unbelievable was that Zheng Mu suddenly turned around in the face of the attack behind him. A hand was actually raised towards the big knife. Boom! Crack! The huge force sank, and the ground trembled. However, to everyone's horror, at this moment, Zheng Mu blocked the blow that was enough to kill a king with just one hand. The strong man exclaimed, looking at Zheng Mu's intact arm, his worldview collapsed at this moment. How is it possible? Ha! Huh. Amidst his horrified screams, the black muzzle pierced directly into his throat, almost failing to poke out all his overnight food. Next moment. After the strong man experienced the first big muzzle explosion in his life, when his blood volume was about to bottom out, the defensive talisman unfolded. A level executioner, eliminated in three seconds. He looked back at the few people who were already stunned. Zheng Mu smiled lightly, and shook the arm just now, let alone a wound, not even a bruise. How on earth did you do it? Wu Chungang was dumbfounded. Shouldn't mechanic be like summoner? gunner, etc. A profession that tends to be squishy. Why would someone be able to use their body to block the heavy batch of the sword without using any equipment? No signs of injury yet? Zheng Mu chuckled, guess. As soon as the voice fell, he immediately used the ghost step. The body floated above everyone's heads like a ghost that had lost its weight. The handsome and tall body seems to be waltzing in the air. The muzzles of the two guns in his hands were pointing at the other professionals below who were still struggling. Bang bang bang. Like golden lotuses scattered above the head, gunshots and flames burst out. In the attack of mechanical creations that also have the skill blessing of battle analysis, the professionals who are retreating steadily have not yet figured out the situation. After a whistling sound above his head, the defensive talisman on his body was inexplicably activated. Guys who activate the defensive talisman, if you don't want to die, evacuate the battle area immediately. Kai Shinkuan hid behind a terminator, and at this moment excitedly and accurately sniped those squishy occupations such as mage and priest who were alone. Just as he finished speaking, the terminator who stood in front of him abruptly raised his gun. It was a sharp shot to the air on one side. Boom! Amidst the loud voice, a figure screamed and flew backwards under the defensive talisman. But it was an assassin who touched in front of Kai Shinkuan when he didn't expect it at all. Ha ha ha, cool. Seeing this, Kai Shinkuan laughed wildly. When the skill cooldown time is up, the rifle in his hand twists and changes again, amidst the cool light effects. The Vulcan cannon that ravaged the audience before appeared again. Boss, smoke. In the next moment, a sound like ripped cloth suppressed the battle sound of the audience. Ah! I can't stop it. Nurse! Damn, where is the nurse? Ah! Seeing that under the opponent's attack, even the shield warrior with its skills deployed can only resist for two seconds with difficulty. The examinees, who had already been thrown outside the combat area because of the deployment of the defensive talisman, were stunned. Hey, where did these guys come from? Look, Boss Wu has been suppressed. Didn't that guy say he is a mechanic? That poor mechanic. 
That woman is so fierce. I saw her rushing towards me just now. Before she could use her skills, she activated her defense with a few knives. What are these? Look at those robots. Ordinary people don't dare to resist such a powerful attack. They seem to have anti-stealth skills. I just sneaked up to them, and the next second the gun was pointed at my forehead. If I didn't have the defensive charm, my brain would be blown out now. The battle here is ending quickly at a speed that no one can understand. As Wu Chungang was surrounded by a dozen T-800s, the guns locked on the opponent. There are very few people around who can resist. Oops. Hearing a coquettish call, Zheng Mu turned his head to look, and saw Ling Bing who had kicked Wu Xuechen to the ground at this moment. Although the defensive talisman has not been activated yet, it has already been put on the neck by the opponent's long knife. Don't be impulsive. Don't be impulsive. We throw in the towel. Seeing this, Wu Chungang didn't dare to hesitate at all, and hurriedly shouted and raised his hands with bow and arrow. Zheng Mu glanced at Ling Bingyue speechlessly. It's a girl anyway, shouldn't you be more or less gentle as a homosexual? Ling Bingyue cast a sideways glance at Zheng Mu. Although she was fighting just now, her attention never left Zheng Mu. The double guns in this guy's hands have been tasted by hundreds of people, among them there are some pretty girls. But when the guy who said he wanted her to pity her, when he shot someone in the mouth, his action was as fast as lightning. He didn't worry at all that these people's defensive charms were defective, and they received their lunch boxes on the spot. Zheng Mu was bored, and then looked at Wu Chungang who was at the side, and spread his hands with a smile. Look, I said it before, it's good to hand over things, and we have to waste so much time together. Wu Chungang gritted his teeth unwillingly. As an S-level professional, he never thought of it. I will usher in the day when I will be eliminated. Wu Chungang couldn't help asking when he thought that as an S-level professional, he couldn't even get into the professional university. If I said, you let our brother and sister go now, I can promise you a condition, what would you say? It's a pity that Zheng Mu shook his head directly, and suddenly pointed to the sky not far away. Hee hee, it looks like someone is more anxious than you are now. Then everyone saw more than a dozen Feiyun boats falling from the clouds and coming towards this side at an extremely fast speed. Stop. Stop it all. Director Wang of Tianji University's face was covered with sweat. Before the Feiyun boat was stable, he had already jumped off the boat one step at a time. Taking three steps in parallel, he hurriedly stopped in front of Zheng Mu. Enough. Now that we have been eliminated, there is no need to kill again. At this moment, Director Wang was afraid that Zheng Mu would act audaciously and let these T-800s directly blast Wu Chungang into scum. This is the only S-level professional in their school this year. Zheng Mu laughed when he heard this. Which eye of this teacher sees that he has been eliminated? Has the defensive charm unfolded? As long as the defensive talisman is not unfolded, even if I kill him, that is allowed by the rules. As he said that, it was as if he wanted to order the mechanical creation to do it. Don't. Don't kill my brother. We surrendered. Hearing the voice from his feet, Zheng Mu looked down at the other party, and then at Wu Chungang, who nodded when he saw the latter. This is how Zheng Mu let him go. It's okay to admit defeat. Take out all the scorecards of everyone, as well as the storage backpack on your body. According to the assessment rules, these are my spoils of war. Director Wang's face twitched, and he really wanted to slap Zheng Mu to death. However, feeling those strong warning gazes on Fei Yun's boat behind him, he finally gritted his teeth and accepted. Now he has to report to the school leaders as soon as possible. Even if Wu Chun Gang, an S-level professional, is eliminated today, then these first-class universities must not give up on each other. However, if you want to operate it, you will inevitably be targeted by those guys from the Southwest Military Military University. A series of violations of the rules must pay a certain price. Looking at a group of dejected examinees queuing up to hand over their belongings, Kai Shinkuan was grinning as he carried the purple weapon given by Zheng Mu on his back. Every time I meet someone, I come to the last sentence. Remember, Grandpa, my name is Kai Shinkuan. 
I'm from Southwest Military Military University. If you have any dissatisfaction, just come to me. Well, if you can enter our campus. Everyone, hey. This guy is so cheap. Thousands of points cards have been collected, and this wave of Zheng Mu has earned at least 300 00 points. And his name will inevitably start today and spread throughout the entire bone tuning desert. It can even be said that it will not take long for his name to spread in the Dragon Kingdom. Boss, there must have been a lot of people sneaking away just now, and the number of assassin type occupations here is obviously not right. Seeing these people getting on the Feiyun boat one after another, Kuei Shinkuen came over. His face was a little ugly. However, Zheng Mu just laughed. Don't worry, I took the initiative to let people go, otherwise, in front of nanomagnetic field scanning, this group of people is no different from streaking. Looking at the puzzled eyes of the two, a meaningful smile appeared on Zheng Mu's face. Looking at the Feiyun boat flying up to the clouds in the distance. Guess what would happen if candidates from other places knew of our existence and our combat effectiveness? Kai Shinkuen exclaimed instantly. Joint. That's right. Zheng Mu nodded, what I want is for them to unite. The more people they unite, the easier it will be for us. The battle here is over, and everyone returns to the base vehicle. Towards the next area, the Haitian school candidates gathered their troops. In the recreation area. While enjoying Tifa's massage, Zheng Mu happily transferred the credit card. Finally, when he saw the numbers on his point card, he couldn't help showing a satisfied smile on his face. Hee hee, this is 410W, and this is not the central area. Candidates from Xingqing University and Beiwu University in the central area must have more points. Thinking about it this way, 200W doesn't seem so difficult to deal with. At the same time, on Feiyun's boat, no matter the people from the supervision office or the heads of the major universities, they were all staring blankly at the ranking list in front of them. Mechanic Xing Mu, currently with 4106429 points, ranking first. Huangfeng Mage Sang Luo, currently has 5491 points, ranking second. Beastmaster Wang Long, currently has 5277 points, ranking third. The Grudge Wizard Jiang Lan Lan, currently has 5,001 points, ranking 4th. Wine Swordsman Gu Ming, currently has 8,034,991 points, ranking 5th. Gu Feng, the Spirit Guide, currently has 4,828 points, ranking 6th. The smile on Qin Ji's face at this moment could no longer be restrained, not only him, but all the staff of the Southwest Military Military University, everyone seemed to have won a huge lottery. Ha ha ha, General, we really found a treasure this time. What kind of S-level professional, several people teamed up can be defeated by Zheng Mu, this kid is really playing with the profession of mechanic. Ha ha ha, it's more than that, you didn't see how ugly the faces of those guys from Tianji University were just now, all kinds of bullying before, and now they are all dumb now. Ha ha ha. The Southwest military officer's side was filled with joy and laughter, and Zheng Mu's concentrated harvesting this time really made them happy. The total number of candidates who originally applied for Tianji University was more than 1100. In the previous week, more than 100 to 200 people were eliminated. Afterwards, under Zheng Mu's targeted hunting, more than 100 people were eliminated. Now the gathering place on the oasis side is taken over by Zheng Mu again. The number of people is directly reduced. At this moment, when Zheng Mu is approaching the Gimhi University area, there will definitely be a lot of gains along the way. Qin Ji looked at the light curtain in front of him. During the battle, dozens of people escaped from the oasis while taking advantage of the chaos. It is conceivable that it won't be long before the entire bone swallowing desert will know about their actions. In the blink of an eye, three or four days passed. Basically, Hunting operations in the desert have been much less, and more people are targeting other professionals. Earning points from others is definitely faster and easier than hunting by yourself. However, when a piece of explosive news appeared, all the candidates who participated in the assessment were completely dumbfounded. The central area of the bone-devouring desert. Do you know what you're talking about? Three people eliminated more than a thousand of you. 
Are you expressing how useless you are, or do you think our brains have been kicked by donkeys? Will you believe your nonsense? Wang Long looked at the thin figure surrounded by several subordinates, his eyes were full of anger. However, this person hastily shook his head. No. I didn't lie to you, that man is Zheng Mu, he said he is an A-level mechanic, he has dozens of mechanical creations under his hands, I, I have a video. After hearing the profession of mechanic, Wang Long squinted his eyes, and couldn't help but think of a figure. Before he could think about anything, the young man in front of him was a Birank tomb thief a ball of light appeared in his hand. The next moment, a picture composed of lights and shadows appeared in front of everyone in the form of 3D. When Wang Long saw Zheng Mu and the three in the picture, his expression turned cold. So it's them. He was about to say something when suddenly an anxious voice came. Boss, boss. The gathering place at Gimhe University has been taken away. It's that mechanic. They're already heading towards the Hanlong University area. What? Chapter, 66. About twenty days have passed since the one-month assessment period. However, the central area of the bone-swallowing desert is unusually lively. Is your gathering place also attacked by that guy? Hey, how many times is this? Hey, don't talk about it, the S-level Wuying assassin He Shangyun Beauty from our Hanlong University, said that Jing Mu bullied the few with more, and asked to fight him one-on-one. -on -one. Guess what? Then I definitely can't agree. Which mage and assassin have you seen one-on-one? -on -one? Even if it's a beautiful woman, you can't accept it. Hee hee, then you are wrong, Zheng Mu immediately agreed, and just stood still, but every time when the beauty of Haida sneaked up to him, he was whipped by the other party before he could make a move. A slap. What? Then Zheng Mu really doesn't understand how to slap a beautiful woman like He Shangyun. Several people gathered together from other areas were discussing in low voices at the moment. And the focus of their discussion is the pilot Jing Mu who is making a lot of noise in the assessment. When he heard that Jing Mu slapped the beauty in a picture like Fan He Shang Yun, a candidate who regarded her as the goddess in his heart suddenly stood up angrily. Hearing his words, the man hurriedly waved his hands. How could it be possible to slap the face, Jing Mu and Hate a beauty have no enmity? The man just breathed a sigh of relief when he heard the second half of the other party's sentence. The one who slapped the buttocks of the beauty Haida, was slapped eighteen times, making everyone cry. In the end, she even said that she should remember Zheng Mu for the rest of her life. An unknown licking dog. Regardless of where the heartbroken sound came from. Along with Zheng Mu and the others, the scope of their activities has become larger and larger these days, and more and more candidates from other schools have escaped from the area they passed through and gathered in Riki in the central area. Also gathered here, there are also a lot of rumors about Zheng Mu and others, which seem to be true or false. In other words, Zheng Mu now has hundreds of lives on his hands, most of whom are women. In other words, Zheng Mu has a mechanical creation in his hand, flying in the sky, which can monitor the overall situation like a Feiyun boat, and all of them are under Zheng Mu's monitoring. Some people simply said that Zheng Mu is not an A-level mechanic at all, but an S-level occupation that looks very similar to a mechanic. All kinds of messages are intertwined in everything, and the end result is just that. Everyone's heart is full of uneasiness. Among them, even the few S-level professionals are rare to get together. I asked a lot of people from there, and what is certain now is that the S-level elf shooter Wu Chun Gang and the S-level Wu Ying assassin He Shang Yun were all defeated by Zheng Mu. Without anyone's help, face-to-face -face confrontation. When Huang Feng Mage Sang Luo said these words, his face was also obviously solemn. Hearing this, Jian Lan Lan, the only woman among them, pouted and whispered to her nephew beside her. Xiao Feng, do you think that Zheng Mu doesn't like girls? He Shang Yun, a beautiful woman who makes me drool like that, but he actually spanked her in public. Which girl would like this kind of person? Gu Feng was embarrassed and didn't know how to answer. He opened his mouth, but in the end he could only choke out one sentence. I will protect you, little aunt, if it's really not possible then, I'll stop him, you run first. The few people on the side looked at the two of them speechlessly. We are still discussing how to deal with it, you two have already decided to run away with buckets? 
do you have any pride that an S-level professional should have? However, what they didn't know was that the pair of aunts and nephews in front of them didn't take this assessment seriously at all. The nature of this is just for fun, the energy of the family plus the capital of two S-level professionals, major mainstream universities, it is simply a random choice. On the contrary, it is exposed to wind and sun all day long in this poor place like the bone-swallowing desert. A little girl like Jian Lan Lan has long been bored. If it is not more or less curious, I want to see Jing Mu, the mechanical demon king in Legendary, she can activate the defensive charm on the spot and choose to give up running. Seeing that the two ignored them at all, Guo Luo's eyes flashed with anger. But in the end, because Jing Mu put too much pressure on him, he chose to give in temporarily. Look at other people. We have two choices now. Everyone's points are almost over 10 0, 0. If there is no problem in passing the assessment according to the rules of previous years, we can go directly to the evacuation point, but there is a high probability that we will be stopped by the other party on the way. Having said that, Guiji pointed to the sky. Everyone raised their heads, and they could vaguely see a few flying eagles that were circling. The matter of the patrol eagle has been known by many people during this period of time. As for the other way, I don't need to say that everyone knows what I mean, sit and wait to be gradually surrounded by the opponent, use that kind of explosive method to sneak attack, and be eliminated one by one, or join forces and take the initiative to attack. However, Gu Ming, who had been holding the sword by his side, shook his head coldly. Five days ago, he was in the Gimhe University area. The day before yesterday, the Hanlong University area was taken away. Yesterday was Xuanhua University where do you think he is today? We don't have his investigative skills, and there is no way to find him in the vast desert. Rise. As soon as these words came out, the atmosphere at the scene suddenly became Shenning again. But at this moment, Wan Long, who had been silent all this time, suddenly spoke. I have a third way here, but I don't know if you dare to take it. Watching everyone look over, Wan Long organized his language. You all know my profession, S rank beast master, this profession allows me to increase my perception of the beast's breath hundreds of times. It can be said that even if it is a monster that is one or two kilometers away from me, I can feel the opponent's breath. Exist. It doesn't matter whether the opponent is on the ground or under the ground. Gu Ming frowned, just tell me, did you find something? Wan Long nodded, took out a map from his pocket and spread it out. On the eye-catching map, there is a striking red circle. In my perception, there is a space underground here, where there is a very terrifying monster atmosphere, according to my estimation, let's say IV-40 less. San Luo frowned. So you want to say, we use that monster to attack the opponent's upcoming Zheng Mu? The LV-40 monster is not something we can defeat. If we really get rid of it, we may encounter a lot of trouble. Zheng Mu will choose to stop after our defensive talisman is opened, but if it is an IV-40 monster, not only will it not stop, our defensive talisman will not be able to withstand the opponent's attack. Wan Long spread his hands. So it depends on your choice. In the worst case, go directly to the evacuation point. Anyway, with my strength, I don't know what chance I have of winning when I meet Zheng Mu, but I am very confident in the successful evacuation. As long as you can accept yourself as an S-level professional, being stepped on by an A-level mechanic, when I didn't say anything. Now, the eyes of several people have changed. In the end, it was Sang Luo who first gritted his teeth and stood up. Try it, at least now I have a certain advantage in the desert, maybe we can temporarily control that monster. Seeing Sang Luo standing up, Wang Long was overjoyed and stood up immediately. I found the place. Although I can feel the breath of the monster, the other party has no reaction. It feels like it is sleeping. We just need to wake up the monster after Zheng Mu goes there. Hearing this, the others finally stood up and agreed. I said, how long are you going to look at me like this? Your eyes are squinting. In the base car that was driving, Zheng Mu was enjoying a rare afternoon tea time, when he saw Lin Bingyue's eyes squinting at him, his mood suddenly became unbearable. Lang Bingyue sneered upon hearing this. How reluctant are you to eat without washing your hands? Then he understood what the other party meant. 
I can only say that everything is a coincidence. Eighteen coincidences in a row. Zheng Mu, well, I admit that after getting to the back, I really couldn't stop, but I can't blame me. After all, who made it feel so good? Seeing Leng Bingyue's face turn colder, Zheng Mu suddenly smiled. Sister Bingyue, are you jealous? Leng Bingyue was taken aback by the sudden rhetorical question, and at the same time, his face flushed instantly. Jealous. Eat you big-headed ghost. Scumbag, into it. Looking at Leng Bingyue who fled after leaving behind a single sentence, Zheng Mu's expression was quite strange. I really think I'm blind, I've reached this point, and I'm still playing Sundra here. TSK TSK TSK, Bingyue, you have to seize the opportunity, or your big brother Mu will be taken away by other women. When Kai Xinkuan walked over, he just heard Jing Mu's stinking words. I was speechless on the spot. However, the operations of my boss these days are indeed quite miraculous, especially that time with the beauty Su Shang Yun. Not to mention myself, even the onlookers around were shocked beyond words by Zheng Mu's coquettish operation. Boss, the remaining candidates have all gathered towards the central area, and they seem to be preparing for a decisive battle with us in the central area. Hearing this, Zheng Mu smiled lightly. Isn't this exactly what we want? If that's the case, then let's go directly to the central area. Candidates from Xingqin University and Beiwu University, we should also have a formal meeting. When the number of patrolling eagles in the sky suddenly began to surge, everyone realized that Xing Mu, who had recently made the entire examination site jump like a dog, was about to arrive at their side. It's not too late. Let's go right away. But Wang Long and the others who saw this scene also acted decisively. The group dispatch of five S-level professionals naturally immediately attracted Jing Mu's attention. Boss, these guys are obviously going in the direction of the evacuation point. Kai Xinkuan was in a hurry. These few are their key targets of revenge, how can they be allowed to run away? Jing Mu's expression changed slightly. Turn around and rush to the evacuation point at full speed. Above the sky. Zheng Mu's hunting behavior these days has finally reached the ears of the upper class. At this moment, in a huge airship far exceeding the size of the Feiyin boat, a gray-haired old man burst into laughter when he saw the picture on the light curtain. Hee <laughs> hee, this kid's temperament is not small. He is really a candidate from other universities. He doesn't intend to let any of them go. He will go directly to the evacuation point and block him. People like Qin Ji and Lu Weiqi stood behind the old man, but their expressions were indescribably disturbed. Especially Lu Weiqi and the others, why didn't they? Unexpectedly, this assessment directly alarmed this big man who was rumored to have been in retreat for many years. Oldly, you can't blame Zheng Mu for this matter, it's all Xing Qin and his gang of bastards. Qin Ji wanted to plead with Zheng Mu for an explanation, but was interrupted by the old man waving his hand with a smile. Relax, old man, I am not here to find fault. This kid is good, and he is indeed suitable for your Southwest Military Military University. To a certain extent, Xingqing University and the others can be regarded as. Did a good job. Lu Weiqi and others. They really don't want this honor at all. Noticing the changes in the expressions of these people, waves flashed in the old man's eyes. In recent years, the number of S-level professionals in our Dragon Kingdom is less than that of other countries, and the top ten guardian gods are all young and powerful. Our strength is not inferior to those countries in the United States, but in the cultivation of professionals, we have been suppressed by other countries year after year. It's a great country, but it can't even make it to the eighth round of the world job competition. The old man's plain eyes fell on everyone. This situation should be reversed, old man, I think it's good to let Jing Mu be the catfish. Hearing this, Qin Ji and other people from the Southwest Military Military University will feel their bodies for a while. They all showed excitement. Although it was not stated explicitly, the name of the First Class Military Officer University in Southwest China was temporarily preserved. But at this moment, one person seemed to notice something. Ha! Huh. Aren't Wang Long and the others going to the evacuation point? Everyone looked at the screen, 
but saw that the five people who originally thought they were planning to rush to the evacuation point to complete the assessment before being stopped by Zhang Mu stopped in ten areas. As the picture zoomed in, the old man frowned slightly. Suddenly, Wang Long let out a roar on the spot, using the skills of the beast master, and turned into a huge pangolin. He started to scrape the sand frantically on the spot, and several people on the side also helped him one after another. What are they doing? Digging in the desert? Everyone was dumbfounded. Wang Long and the others are very fast, and they seem to have a very clear goal. In just half a day, a big hole was dug out, and when everyone didn't know why. In the desert. Clang. The sudden resistance sent Wang Long's claws flying away. Everyone immediately followed the sound. But I only saw something like a stone. The stone was very large, like the head of some kind of biological stone statue. Wang Long Zhao Hao Zhao was extremely excited, and his desire to be a beast master had already made him slightly lose his mind at this moment. After sweating, he turned into a bulldozer again. In just two hours, everyone dug out a hideous monster stone statue. Hiss, is this a bug? After seeing Shi Jinrong, Jian Lan Lan, who is a girl, immediately showed obvious disgust on her face. What makes her even more unacceptable is that the appearance of this stone statue right now is like a huge maggot, with its ferocious mouthparts exposed, giving people an indescribable evil. Heartfelt. What is this? My probing skill level is too low, and I can't see any information at all. Sang Luo was obviously a little nervous at the moment. It seemed that they were afraid that some enemy they could not deal with would rush out of the surroundings in the next second. And Gu Ming also silently pulled out the long sword in his hand. Wang Long, where is the monster you mentioned? When Wang Long heard the question, his expression was full of weirdness. When he turned his head to look at the few people, his tone became strange. Monster? Don't you see it? Isn't it right here? I can feel that it is very powerful, IV-40 is impossible, at least the existence of IV-50. As he said that, under the stunned gaze of everyone, the other party directly stepped forward and stroked the four or five meter tall monster statue in front of him with both hands, making a perverted tisk tisk sound from his mouth. Jiang Lanlin's small face suddenly wrinkled, and she grabbed Gu Feng who was at the side. Little nephew, let's go, this guy is a pervert. Go directly to the evacuation point. Speaking of the whole person, two terrifying evil spirits appeared behind him, and Song Song was about to fly towards them after catching them. However, right here, a violent trembling suddenly came. The yellow sand began to flow back into the big pit. Get out! Sang Luo roared, and with a wave of his hand, the skill was activated, and the yellow sand waterfall falling from the top of his head instantly dispersed as if controlled by some force. But just as he was about to fly away, a scream suddenly came from behind. That's Wang Lung's voice. Ah. Help me. Chapter, 67. Ah. Help me. Wang Long's scream suddenly sounded from behind. Sang Luo turned his head instinctively, but his pupils shrank in fright at the scene behind him, and his face turned pale instantly. I saw that the strange insect that was just a stone statue before, unexpectedly at this moment, the outer stone layers of its body shattered. The disgusting grey-white bloated body inside was revealed. However, what made San Luo feel even more horrifying? At this moment, the other party has already grabbed Wang Long in front of him without anyone's thinking. Sang Luo. Save me. Sang Luo was awakened by Wang Long's horrified screams, and before he had time to think about it, the latter immediately manipulated the surrounding yellow sand and used his skills. Bone Crushing Sand The next moment, a torrent of yellow sand, with the aura of a roaring train, ruthlessly rushed towards the strange insect in front of it. However, the next moment. Squeak. A sharp sound, like a sharp knife piercing into the brain and stirring crazily, was only a momentary effort. Originally, Sang Luo was still controlling the yellow sand like the lord of the desert. In an instant, blood began to flow from the mouth, nose, and eyes, and the body softened and fell to the ground with a thud. But the yellow sand controlled by skills also collapsed instantly. Sang Luo, 
lying on the ground, only felt intense pain all over his body. On the panel, the number representing his blood bar had dropped to the red area. I, I have more than 3,000 blood how is it possible? Seeing that Sang Luo was seriously injured by the sound wave just now with just one move, Wang Long was desperate at that time. Transform quickly. Transform quickly. Transform me into a mammoth. Roaring, no matter how Wang Long activates his skills, there is only a line of scarlet red prompts on the panel, which keeps flashing. Silent state, unable to use skills. Silent state. He looked at the insect claws that were inserted into his body and bound him tightly in front of him, his legs softened, and a stench of the sun came from between his legs. The ferocious mouthparts have been opened, which is enough to stuff a person into it, and the esophagus full of ferocious barbs finally made Wang Long unable to hold back any longer. Ah! Help! Pfft! Zero Nine saw that his legs were trembling violently, but his upper body was Wang Long who had been stuffed into the monster's mouth. Sun Luo was also desperate at this moment. He tried hard to get up, but he couldn't even lift a finger. Abnormal state mental breakdown, temporarily incapacitated, lasting for two minutes. Gritting his teeth, watching the monster that swallowed Wang Long whole after the mouthpart squirmed, Sang Luo used the only skill he could use at the moment. Exploration Name Golden Huan Worm Mother Boss. Race, Zerg. Level, IV 63. HP, 14, 6 W 20 W. MP, 12, 8 W 21 W. Strength, 339. Agility, 542. Spiritual Power, 8607. Constitution, 3493. Skills, Insect Mother LV3. Insect Emperor Breath LV2, Summoning Insect Swarm IV3, Mind Trampling IV2, Regeneration IV2. Sanlo. You fucking killed me. Sang Luo gave up the last struggle, and began to rewind quickly about his short life in his mind. The second generation ancestor of a wealthy family in the Northwest, he is proficient in eating, drinking, whoring and gambling but he is still a good boy in the eyes of his parents, so it's okay to have such an enviable background. He was also awakened in the awakening ceremony and became one of the few S-level professionals in the entire Blue Star. However, everything will end in front of this monster that he can't shake at all. LV-63, and it is still at the boss level. Let alone the current him, giving him ten lives is no match for this thing. And just when Sang Luo was ready to close his eyes and welcome the arrival of death. The sand lying on the ground squirmed. Then, a mass of moving sand suddenly enveloped him, his vision went dark, and he waited until he recovered again. But he was surprised to find that he was being carried by someone and was flying in the sky. If you don't want to die, cheer me up. Jiang Lanlin's anxious voice came, and she turned her head to look behind her. Under her body, she found herself lying on a sand ball like a slime. At this moment, this thing is still gliding on the desert at an extremely fast speed. It was the desert elf summoned by Gufong. Suddenly, as if he had thought of something, his face turned pale and he shouted excitedly. Run! Run at full speed! That thing has level IV-63 and is a boss. Hearing this, even Gu Ming, who was a little calm among the few people, changed color at this moment. Hurry up. Go to the evacuation point. The situation monitoring office here must have discovered it, let's leave it alone and keep ourselves safe. And just like what Gu Ming said. At this moment in the sky, the Japanese Feiyun boat has already issued a sharp alarm. Quick. Immediately rule over the nearby candidates and let them evacuate towards the distance immediately. Don't approach that area. Mobile team, immediately find a way to eliminate this monster as soon as possible. All personnel are caught in unprecedented anxious work. In the command room, Elder Lee's face was icy cold, and Tai didn't know when he appeared here. Hasn't the assessment site been screened in advance? Didn't it report that there were no monsters beyond the expected range? What is this? Chi Tai secretly groaned, but Lu Weichi who was beside him also immediately spoke out. Chi Tai, your dereliction of duty caused us to lose an S-level genius. 
Wan Long is a beast master. As long as he is trained well, it is not impossible to become one of the top ten protectors of Shindu in the future. You sinner of the Dragon Kingdom. This guy Lu Weiqi roared, his eyes were red, if he didn't know the other person, he would really think that he was grieving for the fall of the genius of Longguo. Okay. Don't say anything meaningless. The first task now is to solve the unexpected boss as soon as possible to ensure the smooth progress of the assessment. As he spoke, elderly looked at Qin Ji who was at the side. Qin Ji, He Guang, you too. Old Li. Take a look. Mr. Li's order was suddenly interrupted by an officer beside him. When everyone saw the scene in the screen, they all gasped. Hiss. Damn it, this monster can still be summoned. Only in the screen. The golden worm mother, who was still silently staying in the big pit, suddenly let out a piercing scream. The next moment, the surrounding yellow sand was like boiling water. After a burst of violent stirring, Zerg monsters at least two meters high poured out from the desert in large swaths. Just by breathing, there are thousands of Zerg like this. However, this speed does not mean to slow down in the slightest. Now, even Mr. Lee stood up directly at this moment, and gave the order without hesitation. Order all mobile personnel, ignore these monsters, and organize the evacuation of nearby candidates as soon as possible, and evacuate towards the outer edge of the desert. Obviously, the situation was too sudden, and I thought it would ensure the continuation of the assessment. Ensuring the safety of candidates is the top priority right now. Notify Huangsha City, let them send forces into the desert, and assist nearby candidates to evacuate. Looking at the Feiyun boats suddenly coming down from the clouds, it seemed that they had entered a state of emergency. The three of Zheng Mu sitting in the base car looked confused. Master, an extremely dangerous boss has appeared in the desert, with a detection level of IV-63. The voice of the Red Queen came, and as the screens of the huge light curtain in front of him changed, the figure of the Golden Worm Mother appeared in it. What made Jing Mu gasp was that at this moment, apart from this Golden Worm Mother, there were tens of thousands of Zerg monsters of different shapes around her. Fuck, level 63. Before the military chose the assessment site, didn't they conduct a thorough investigation of this place? While Kai Shinkuen looked terrified, he couldn't help but feel rejoicing. Fortunately, boss, we went to the evacuation point to stop them. If we take the initiative to find them, even if we face such a terrifying group of monsters, we will be cool. Zheng Mu nodded with a dignified expression. But what made him feel even more dignified was that this was the first time he had truly seen the horror of Zerg monsters. I saw in the picture, with the mobilization of the patrol eagle, the picture of the scene became more and more comprehensive. The approximate size of the swarm was finally determined. 1700, although most of them are below IV-15, but in front of the huge number, even IV-15 Zerg can pose a threat to human cities. Needless to say, this is obviously the number of summons for the first wave of Golden Worm Mothers right now. As long as you give it enough time, this amount will only increase. Seeing this, Zheng Mu narrowed his eyes suddenly. The words are amazing. Turn around. Head towards the swarm. What? Are you crazy? Leng Bingyue exclaimed. Kai Xinkuan also looked at Zheng Mu in horror. Boss, boss, that's a LV-63 monster, and it's also a boss didn't we deliver food in the past? Zheng Mu shook his head. It's not enough to deliver the food. It's very easy for us to evacuate. Not to mention anything else, put the base car away and put it in the storage backpack. At the speed of the liquors, we will not be caught up at worst. But what if we can kill quite a few Zerg in this wave? Zheng Mu patted the table in front of him meaningfully, and pointed to the base. Didn't you keep asking me if there is any way to attack this base? Don't you want to see it? Well, Zheng Mu's reason made Leng Bingyue and Leng Bingyue stop talking for a moment. After seeing the power of Optimus Prime, it would be a lie to say that there is no curiosity about the more advanced and obviously more powerful Red Hero class Transformers base. Seeing that the two stopped talking, the Red Queen immediately followed Zheng Mu's order and turned the direction of the base vehicle again. Didi. 
and just as he made a move, there was a rushing sound from the scorecard in his hand. Attention all candidates. Attention all candidates. Unexpected monsters appeared in the examination result, which is extremely dangerous. Please stay away from the coordinates XX, YY immediately, please stay away from the coordinates XX, YY immediately. Candidates who are near this coordinate, evacuate to the distance immediately, and the Feiyun boat will rescue you in the shortest possible time. The supervision office directly said rescue. Obviously, no one thought that under such circumstances, there would be people who dared to go to that area to deal with the group of monsters that far exceeded their level and ability. And precisely, Zheng Mu has been different from ordinary people since the beginning of the assessment. But in everyone. When they were all busy evacuating the surrounding candidates, they drove his giant base car. Head towards the coordinates in the notification. Master, found the target person who is evacuating, and it is expected to meet us in five minutes. Never mind. Yes. Jiang Lanlan and the others ran away with their lives and immediately forgot the time. It wasn't until everyone's MP was almost exhausted that they finally stopped. Those, those monsters shouldn't be catching up so quickly, right? Gu Feng was out of breath. As an S-level spirit guide, maintaining the desert elves for a long time and moving at a high speed along the way was definitely not a trivial matter for him. At this moment, the remaining MP recovery potion on his body during this time has also been used up, his face is pale, and he looks back from time to time. On the side, Jian Lanlin's small face was also slightly pale. On the way to escape just now, there were more than a dozen Zerg chasing towards them, all supported by the two evil spirits behind her. After finally getting rid of the pursuit, everyone looked exhausted. Can't stop, go, go to the evacuation point as soon as possible. Gu Ming put away his weapons, and directly carried Sang Luo and Gu Feng on his shoulders one by one, but at this moment, a rumbling sound made everyone's expressions change. Isn't it, you caught up so quickly? Jiang Lanlan finally showed obvious panic at this moment. However, just as they nervously found a sand dune to hide from. The first thing that catches the eye is a figure running fast across the desert. 247 that's that's the mechanical creation of that guy Jing Mu. Everyone was startled, and before they figured out why Jing Mu appeared here, behind a sand dune, a huge monster rose from behind. When I saw the huge chariot with a height of four or five stories. Everyone's mind is blank. Is this also Zheng Mu's mechanical creation? Sang Luo opened his mouth wide, his Adam's apple kept shaking with tension. For example, T-800, Liquor, Patrol Eagle and the most criticized bomber beetle by candidates, everyone already knows about it during this period of time. However, after so long, no one has ever known that Zheng Mu still has such a terrifying chariot in his hands that is so exaggerated beyond their imagination. Suddenly, Jiang Lanlan seemed to have thought of something, and rushed towards the chariot. Stop it! Stop it! Little ant! Everyone was shocked and they saw Jiang Lanlan rushing directly towards the other party. Gu Feng even accidentally fell from Gu Ming's shoulder to the ground. In the base vehicle, seeing Jiang Lanlan running towards this side, Zheng Mu frowned slightly. At this time, I don't want to rush towards the evacuation point. What are you doing to stop him? With a creak, amidst a burst of sand and dust, the little girl Jiang Lanlan ate a mouthful of sand. Ba, ba, ba. The side of the base car went down a step, and Zheng Mu came out. Looking at the embarrassed Jiang Lanlan, she asked. What are you doing here? Are you going to give me your points card? Jiang Lanlan saw Zheng Mu. Although it was the first time the two met, Almost all the examinees knew what Jing Mu looked like now. He didn't care about the sand that was thrown all over his body. Haven't you received the news of the point card? There was an accident in the central area, and we escaped from there, and a super terrifying Zerg boss appeared there. Jing Mu looked at the anxious look strangely, the little girl who was not fake at all. I didn't expect the other party to stop them, thinking that they didn't know the news. Shaking his head slightly, a polite smile appeared on Zheng Mu's face. I accept your kindness. However, I knew what you said a long time ago. Not only did I know the situation there, 
but I also knew that some unlucky guy who took you there got into the stomach of a monster. Hearing this, Jian Lan Lan felt embarrassed instead. She hadn't forgotten what purpose she had in the first place when she waited for someone to find that monster. However, she was taken aback immediately. Exclaimed. You said you were going to take the initiative to find that monster. Are you crazy? Zheng Mu looked at the watch in his hand, he was in a hurry. He wanted to arrive while the insect swarm was gathering as much as possible, only in that way could he maximize the power of his big treasure. Student, I'm in a hurry now, whether you think I'm in a hurry to reincarnate, or something else, either you hurry to the evacuation point, or get in the car and oh. Let's reincarnate together. Chapter 68. In the base car. There was something wrong with the atmosphere, not only Zheng Mu found out, but Kai Xinkuan didn't even dare to take a breath. With a cold face, Leng Bingyue looked at Jiang Lan Lan and the others who were curiously looking around after they came up. I didn't realize you were so fraternal before. How long has it been since you met another one? Leng Bingyue's aura is inexplicably strong at this moment. Gu Feng and the others, who were in an unfamiliar environment, all looked embarrassed. They wanted to say something, but they didn't know how to say it. Jiang Lan Lan, on the other hand, didn't seem to sense that the iceberg beauty standing in front of her wanted to sharpen her sword and give her a good time. After seeing each other, Hai Face was pleasantly surprised. You must be Lang Bingyue. I heard about you, Frost Wind Swordsman. Those who are driven around by you often say that you are the Bingfeng female devil. Fuck. As soon as these words came out, Zheng Mu and the others immediately felt the surrounding atmosphere become cold. Even Gu Feng, who was standing behind Jiang Lan Lan, tugged at the corner of his little aunt's clothes nervously at this moment, I didn't mean that her place is Zheng Mu's stronghold. As far as our current HP and MP are half disabled, we don't even have a chance to resist. They didn't forget that there was no news of the suspension of the assessment that lifted the killing restriction yet. Leng Bingyue also had a flash of surprise in his dangerous eyes. She seemed to be amazed, where did the fish on the chopping board in front of her have the courage to jump around on her chopping board? Seeing that Leng Bingyue was smiling slightly at this moment, Zheng Mu hurriedly stopped between them. Well, classmate Jiang Lan Lan, we have a special lounge with hot water and a shower room. You can wash up first, and you will come out later. If there is any problem, I will talk to you. As soon as the words fell, Jiang Lanlin's eyes widened with surprise. Bathroom? But Gu Feng and others on the side couldn't keep up with Jing Mu's brain circuit at all. Brother, we are on the way of reincarnation now, if we don't want to turn around and leave quickly, why are we still in the mood to take a bath? Could it be that before dying, pickle yourself into the flavor? so that those Zerg monsters will be gentler. However, Cheng Mu and Kai Xinkuan didn't give them a chance to ask questions at all, and directly walked them into several empty rooms. The Shura field was temporarily released, and Kai Xinkuan immediately sent Cheng Mu a Morse code unique to men. Kai Xinkuan, boss, I helped you this time. After you go back, you must promise to get me a blonde lowly robot made with twin ponytails. Cheng Mu, as long as it is not exactly the same as my Mary Rose, you can give me a picture and I will help you. Kai Xinkuan, boss is wise. Zheng Mu, brotherly loyalty. Kai Xinkuan slipped away, and he was only responsible for guerrilla assistance. For a frontal battlefield like this, he could only rely on Zheng Mu himself. Ahem, well, I didn't expect this girl to be so warm-hearted. Who would have thought that she would actually come up? Zheng Mu's defense did not change Lang Bingyue's expression in the slightest. When you say such reluctant words, please pay attention to your micro-expression management. You are smiling, smiling happily. BX. Micro-expression management. When did you, Lang Bingyue, understand this thing? Seeing that Zheng Mu was speechless, Lang Bingyue hummed softly. I'm also a girl, and I know girls better than you guys. Don't look at that Jiang Lanlin scheming look, tell you, this kind of talent is the most dangerous, not to mention her identity is obviously not simple. When Leng Bingyue said this, it seemed to be to make Xing Mu believe in herself. Deliberately got closer. The faint scent of mint was introduced into Xing Mu's nasal cavity, 
looking at the delicate expression of the other party, he looked really cute. Suddenly, Zheng Mu's head moved forward. Well. Leng Bingyue was stunned. Zheng Mu herself was a little confused, what the fuck, it's not me. Looking at Leng Bingyue whose brain seemed to be down, Zheng Mu just kept doing nothing. Pat. He forced Leng Bingyue to the edge of the corridor, blocking his way with one arm. Looking at the sluggish Leng Bingyue, Zheng Chang endured a greasy feeling of nausea. Hold up the opponent's smooth chin. Bingyue, you care so much about other girls around me, do you want to be a housekeeper? Sage Sheng Mu, you are a fucking beast. At the same time, Jiang Lan Lan and the others were already stunned by the facilities in the room of Zheng Mu's base vehicle. Jiang Lan Lan whimpered and soaked in the steaming bathtub, the aroma was overflowing. Beside her, a massage robot is at work. Jiang Lan Lan, wooish. Next room. Gu Ming soaked in the bathtub, his head was empty. Sang Luo and Gu Feng are grinning and enjoying the service of the back rubbing robot. Yes, just clean it here, even if it is dead, the garden must be clean and dead. When several people who were comfortable and put on clean clothes came out of the room, Tifa directly took them to the leisure area in the base vehicle. When they came here, they were surprised again by the neatly placed wine cabinets and various leisure game tables. And when she saw that there was a robot that could bartender serving here, Jiang Lan Lan ran over excitedly. Student Zheng Mu. You are amazing here. It's unimaginable that you can be so comfortable when you go out to fight monsters and upgrade. As he spoke, he couldn't help looking around again. Gu Feng and the others also nodded one after another. The white-haired Gu Ming stared at Zheng Mu. The person who gave me that dangerous feeling in the teleportation square in Yuanping City that day, should be you? Zheng Mu was taken aback for a moment, then smiled slightly, as a tacit agreement. Seeing that no one was talking about the current matter, Sang Luo, who had personally experienced the horror of the Golden Huang Chong mother, suddenly became anxious. Student Zheng Mu, you should hurry up and tell us about your plan. Is it true that you plan to fight that Golden Worm mother? As he said that, without waiting for Zheng Mu's answer, he immediately clicked on his own panel, displaying the information about the Golden Worm Mother that had been detected before. This boss is supposed to be in an injured state. He was hibernating underground in the desert for self-healing, but he was discovered by Wang Long, but classmate Jing Mu, 14000. Even if it is injured, it still has a full blood volume of 14000. How are you going to kill that monster with 14000 HP under the protection of tens of thousands of bugs? Looking at the excited Sang Luo, the other party was trembling, and everyone could see his fear. On the side, Gu Ming told about Sang Luo's narrow escape, but Zheng Mu just nodded when he heard the words. Not only did he not have the slightest intention to turn back, but a confident smile appeared on his face. If I had only a 40% chance of winning before, then after seeing the investigation information of student Sang Luo, I am at least 80% sure. 80% sure. Everyone was suspicious, even Jiang Lanlan couldn't help tugging at Jing Mu's sleeve. The small movement made Leng Bingyue on the side narrow his eyes. You don't intend to let your mechanical creations fight the swarm. If so, you must not. Although I don't know why your mechanical creations can have such a high dodge frequency in battle, but they are Zerg, monsters that are not afraid of death, not humans. Jiang Lanlan's anxious expression made Kai Shinkuan, who was watching the play with his arms crossed, lose his eyesight. He looked at his boss. No, shouldn't it be? Boss has already reached this point of excellence. Zheng Mu gave a dry cough, and without a trace, he broke away from the other party's hand holding him, and smiled faintly. Just watch quietly, even if the plan fails, I can guarantee that each of you will make it to the evacuation point alive. Zheng Mu had already said that, and it was hard for everyone to say anything more. However, they all became curious about what kind of methods Zheng Mu, an A-level mechanic, could use to shock the world. While Zheng Mu and the others were rushing towards the Golden Worm Mother, at this moment there was already a fight on the other side. As the leader and summoner of these Zerg races, Jin Huang's insect mother was more difficult than Qin Ji and the others expected. Exploding Fist Mysteries Heavenly Fireworks 
The Feiyin boat was still in mid-air, but He Guang had already jumped down, his fists waved wildly in the void, bursting into flames. The next moment, the flames wrapped around He Guang's body, turning into a violent falling meteor. Boom! With just one move, the Zerg within more than 100 meters from Fang Yuan were instantly smashed to pieces by the shock wave. However, just in the blink of an eye, the sandy ground was turbulent again. Dozens of praying mantis-like monsters rushed out in an instant, heading towards He Guang who was still in a state of frozen skills. Crack! Qin Ji's figure instantly came in front of the other party, and thunder exploded in the sky. The long sword in his hand reaches to the sky. Roar! Lei Gong help me! In the next moment, several thunderbolts suddenly fell from the clear sky, splitting these almost LV-30 Zerg guards into coke. However, Qin Ji and the others all changed their colors one after another when they saw the sand that started to swell again. Damn it, how many monsters can this guy summon? Is it over? What are Lu Weiqi and his gang doing? Why haven't they dealt with the Worm Mother yet? He was answered by figures flying back in embarrassment. Above the sky, Liang Jindong, the vice president of Beiwu University, was holding an apparently unconscious figure in his hand, with blood in his mouth, and quickly evacuated towards the rear Feiyin boat. Director Wang of Tianji University also withdrew in the blink of an eye, and when he saw the eyes of several people, he immediately turned into a face of mourning. General Qin, this worm mother is not ordinary. Not only does the mental attack skill have a short cooling time, but its power can at least reach the level of an IV-70 monster. We are not good at this. Qin Ji and the others felt like cursing immediately. Right now, the Golden Worm Mothers are still in the injured stage, and they are basically trying to avoid fighting them head-on. Once he fully recovers, is it necessary to dispatch the God of War order? Each of the top ten protectors of the country is in a very important place, and they must be real and cannot be used at will. If you can, even if you risk your life, you must try your best to kill the danger in the cradle. Qin Ji and the others shuddered at the thought that if this worm mother escaped today, the bone-swallowing desert would directly become a Zerg base camp in the future. And on Qin Ji's side, leading the people from the Southwest Military Military University, against the dense swarm of insects, they headed towards the golden yellow worm. When advancing in the direction of the mother, Qi Tai's anxious voice suddenly came from the communicator at his waist. General Qin. Something is wrong, Zheng Mu is heading towards you. There are a few other remaining S-rank candidates in his car. Qin Ji felt dizzy for a while. What? With a deep leap, as his skills were displayed, a thin cloud of air condensed under his feet, which actually led him directly into the midair. In the howling wind, Qin Ji saw at a glance the huge chariot rushing up and down at a slow speed. The billowing wind and sand rose from behind the opponent, and Qin Ji was so angry that he didn't faint. At this moment, he suddenly understood that his teacher was angry when he impulsively enrolled in Japanese universities. Damn it! Just add trouble to me. Zheng Mu brought not only him this time, but also several other S-level newcomers, except for Gu Ming who came from a common family. Behind the rest of the people are either rich or expensive. Once something happens, it will really provoke a lot of people. Master, General Qin Ji is rushing here and is expected to arrive in five seconds he is here. Zheng Mu and the others couldn't help swallowing a mouthful of saliva when they saw Qin Ji's furious appearance in the light curtain. Sang Luo and Gu Feng immediately raised their hands. Let me tell you first, we were pulled up by someone. Kai Xinkuan immediately gave the two of them a disdainful look. Zheng Mu shook his head, and directly ordered Hong Ho to open the car door. After a while, Qin Ji came to Zheng Mu and the others under the leadership of Tifa with an angry look on his face. However, after seeing such a terrifying function and structure in this base vehicle, the anger on his face was obviously washed away by surprise. Didn't you receive the notification of the point card? What are you going to do there? Do you think it takes too long? Gu Feng and the others immediately stood aside without hesitation, as if they had forgotten who invited them to take a good bath. Zheng Mu didn't speak, and gestured to the Red Queen beside him with his eyes. 
The next moment, a high-altitude bird's-eye view screen covering the entire Zerg battle area appeared in the eyes of everyone. Zheng Mu pointed to He Guang and others who were rushing towards the insect mother, but at a very slow speed at the moment. General Qin should be able to see the situation on the scene more clearly now, right? Your current advancing speed is simply not as fast as that worm mother's transfer speed Wang Li's. As he said that, the position of a pothole in the picture suddenly magnified. But I saw a large cockroach, moving the bloated insect mother, slowly moving towards the lower layer of the desert. Down below, dozens of bugs of various shapes are quickly digging the tunnel. Judging by the speed, within an hour at most, the worm mother can simply disappear from everyone's sight. And within an hour, they didn't even have time to transfer a large number of candidates in the area. General Qin, the worm mother will run away at that time, but the worms it summons will not disappear, and the number will inevitably increase you are too late. Get everyone out. Hearing Zheng Mu's analysis, Qin Ji fell silent. So you plan to keep the worm mother behind before she evacuates? Suddenly Qin Ji seemed to have thought of something, and suddenly slapped his thigh. Yes. Why didn't I think of it? Zheng Mu looked confused, what did you think of? Qin Ji's eyes suddenly brightened. The worm mother's biggest attack method now is the powerful mental attack skill that is difficult to parry. Even if this kind of attack is given to me, it may not be possible. Inside. But you are different. No, I mean your mechanical creations are different. Zheng Mu suddenly realized that it was so. But he shook his head and smiled slightly. What the general said is indeed a solution, as long as you help me to tear a little hole, or simply take my mechanical creations to the top of the worm mother's head and drop them. Go, try them all. It's just too troublesome. Trouble? Qin Ji was stunned, this is a fucking urgent matter, why are you telling me to trouble me? I really hope that I can follow my words and kill that monster with a simple sentence. This is easy, but is it possible? Looking at Qin Ji's sullen expression, Zheng Mu could see that the other party really wanted to teach him a lesson from his senior. But. General Qin, I know you are in a hurry, but don't be in a hurry. Chapter, 69. General Qin, I know you are in a hurry, but don't worry. Zheng Mu pointed to the interior of the base vehicle around him, and asked meaningfully. General, don't you really think that my base car is for logistics and for your own enjoyment? Qin Ji was silent, he looked at the clothes of several people at the moment. Except for Zheng Mu, Leng Bingyue and Kai Xinkuan who are still normal, aside. Jiang Lanlan was wearing a plush pajamas with rabbit ears, and in her arms was a bucket of half-eaten fried chicken, um, sprinkled a lot of cumin. Gu Feng and Sang Luo are just a pair of big healthcare short sleeves and oversized pants. Or Gu Ming was born in a common family, more or less sensible, and able to endure his temper. At this moment, apart from holding a glass of orange soda in his hand and slippers on his feet, he is still wearing equipment. Ahem. Zheng Mu cleared his throat, he was also a little embarrassed, but then he said with a righteous face. General Qin, you don't need to look at them like they have never seen the world, just talk about us, do you think we are enjoying it now? Qin Ji was silent again. According to the pictures he saw on the Feiyun boat during this period, the three of them, Zheng Mu, had never changed their clothes every day, and at this moment, Lin Bingyue had obviously put on a little makeup. Think about other candidates, a set of clothes is basically a month. Some people were unlucky enough that their equipment was broken during the battle with monsters, so they could only wear a piece of green equipment that didn't match at all. As for girl makeup. They don't just want to put on makeup, they also want to take a beautiful bath, and have a beauty sleep without any psychological burden. However, this place is the bone-swallowing desert. The bone-eating desert full of monsters. Who has such a huge caravan like Zheng Mu's that is not afraid of the wind and the sun? Who has Zheng Mu's mechanical creation that can patrol 24 hours and be responsible for security? TSK, General Qin, if you insist on looking at me this way, then I can't help it. I have worked hard, under tremendous pressure, and with hundreds of years of ridicule that mechanics are useless, to create so many machines. Creation. Isn't it possible for me to enjoy myself in the end? Well, give up the sophistry. 
I really lived a bit extravagantly. But he dared to swear to God, that means there was a girl like Leng Binyue in the car. If he's the only one here, he he he, Tifa and Mary Rose will be busy. Okay, tell me about this base handlebar of yours, you mean, you big, heavy guy, can you still fight? Your base car, although powerful, is not suitable for combat after all. Even in the form of a chariot, the speed is too slow, especially in this undulating desert environment, there is no combat advantage. Once you are chased by the zerg, you, a big guy, will only be overwhelmed by the zerg, and then dismantled into pieces. Hearing Qin Ji's serious analysis, he raised his eyebrows. Quiet way. General Qin, apart from sometimes exercising my muscles and bones, I am very disgusted with that kind of punching like a reckless man. Compared with charging into the battle, I prefer to see my enemy being charged into the battle by my mechanical creation. Qin Ji could not help but glance at the light curtain beside him. He Guang, an A-level 467 bomber, is doing exactly what Jing Mu said at the moment. In the swarm of insects that can't see the side, rushing from left to right, charging into battle, punching to the flesh. On the side, Gu Ming couldn't help but glanced at the long sword on his waist, thinking of his fighting style, that is to say, in Jing Mu's eyes, he was also that kind of reckless man. Seeing that Qin Ji couldn't accept that he could solve the crisis of the insect mother at the moment, Jing Mu didn't want to explain anymore. Seeing that it was almost the same distance from the battle scene, he directly asked the Red Queen to expand the base. Following Zheng Mu's order, everyone still stood firmly without any shaking or trembling. However, under everyone's horrified gaze, the internal structure of the base began to change rapidly. These changes are made in the blink of an eye. The Red Queen, gather all the patrolling eagles over the battle scene. I want to fully grasp every zerg on the scene, and I must not let these guys escape from my hands. The Red Queen responded. Qin Ji, who was at the side, looked at Jing Mu's confident look, and couldn't help but have some doubts in his heart. Could it be that Jing Mu is really capable of dealing with these, even if they all need to call in some support zerg monsters? As soon as he had this thought, Qin Ji couldn't help but shook his head. He admitted that Jing Mu is indeed a genius who can have a higher future. Even in his heart, as long as Jing Mu develops with peace of mind, improves his strength, and does not go astray, after a few decades, he will definitely be one of the top ten guardian gods of the Dragon Kingdom. However, the high evaluation of Jing Mu's future does not mean that he can accept the big talk Jing Mu is saying now. Jing Mu, you don't need to worry about things here. Your points are already enough, and you are also the number one. As for your reward for the winner, after you enroll in our Southwest Military Military University, we will give it to you. Your. However, you still carry out the order now. Immediately take the people here and evacuate to the evacuation point. Qin Ji looked solemn, and he had already prepared for the worst in the current situation. If this insect mother escapes today, the military responsible for the on-site inspection will inevitably be punished to a certain extent. And the Southwest Military Attaché University, which is closely related to the military, must also be affected to a certain extent. However, Jing Mu acted as if he didn't hear Qin Ji's order at the moment. Directly lead a few people towards the direction of an elevator. As the elevator reached the top floor, Zheng Mu and the others reappeared on the rooftop of the base. From here, it is already possible to clearly see most of the battlefield. Master, the patrol eagles have been deployed, and there are currently 36,615 attacking Zerg monsters on the battlefield, and the overall number is still increasing. When Qin Ji saw this beautiful woman and said that the overall number of Zergs on the battlefield had increased, he didn't believe it. However, when a huge 3D sandbox appeared in front of him in a burst of blue light, and the position of each monster and professional was accurately marked on it. Qin Ji was stuck when he reached the words on his lips. He stared at the technological sand table with bright eyes, and couldn't help but look up at the patrolling eagles above the sky. It was one thing to know the role of these flying eagles at the beginning, but it was another thing when seeing the battlefield effect constructed by flocks of patrolling eagles. Well, Jing Mu, can your mechanical creation be sold? Jing Mu was taken aback. Sell mechanical artifacts. 
He really hadn't thought about this question, but Tian Dao didn't say that it couldn't be sold. At best, after the mechanical creation is sold, the function will be automatically turned off when targeting him as the maker in the future. Uh, let's talk about this issue later, please General Qin now, let's get all our people down as soon as possible, we're going to start fighting here. Qin Ji took a breath and hesitated. Now their people have already killed the central area, and they are about to touch the Golden Worm Mother. Withdraw at this time. Really withdraw? He asked unwillingly, now He Guang and the others have reached the central area. Zheng Mu rolled his eyes. So, General Qin, how do you think you can educate them to be able to deal with that mental attack? Qin Ji was speechless, and finally gritted his teeth as he watched the number representing the number of zergs on the virtual sand table continue to rise. He took out his communication device. Attention everyone, evacuate the combat area immediately. Repeat. Evacuate the combat area immediately. When this voice came out from the communicator on He Guang and the others who were fighting, everyone was startled. Jin Huangmu. As soldiers, they still carried out the order immediately. However, those who also heard this order from the communicator were the people who were in charge of commanding and dispatching above the sky. In the huge meeting room. When Qin Ji's order to evacuate the battle area immediately came out, some people who were urgently contacting the nearest support were stunned. What? Retreat? Qin Ji, what does he want to do? Seeing that he has already been able to restrain that worm mother. Why retreat? An imposing military boss immediately picked up the communicator in his hand, ready to cancel the other party's order. However, the old man on the side said lightly. Forget it, everyone has already come down. As soon as the words came out. Everyone turned their heads to look, but He Guang and the others had already evacuated to the periphery of the swarm. When advancing, it is extremely difficult to advance one meter. However, when retreating, the retreat was completed in the blink of an eye. Mr. Lee stared coldly at the worm mother who was busy evacuating in the picture. This is a smart guy, or a monster whose level has reached a certain level, and his intelligence is actually not low. Even though the other party was protected by tens of thousands of Zerg, they did not give any pursuit to the evacuated professionals. Not only that, but also actively asked the Zerg to give them an evacuation channel. Oldly, why don't I do it myself, that kid Qin Ji didn't know what he was doing wrong, but he ordered to retreat at this time. The general frowned, stood up and said proactively. Mr. Lee glanced at him, and looked at the other party's slightly shriveled trouser legs. Little bear, I believe you have the determination to fight that worm mother to the death, but let's see what that kid Qin Ji is going to do first. You know who he is, and sometimes he is impulsive, but in the face of big right and wrong, he can still figure it out. As he said that, Mr. Lee asked people to directly reveal Qin Ji's position at the moment. Oh. That's the mechanical creation of that Jingmu kid, isn't it? Seeing the prostrate steel building at the edge of the battle area, Old Li's eyes lit up. Immediately, someone connected to Qin Ji's communication. General Qin, he said he received a message from your side ordering the retreat, explain it to me, an old man. On the roof of the base, when he heard that it was Mr. Li calling directly to inquire, Qin Ji also instinctively raised his chest and raised his head immediately. Yes, Mr. Li, it's mainly because I detected our current attack through Xing Mu's mechanical creations. Not only did I not be able to suppress the number of insect swarms, but it was still expanding. Also, those of us basically don't have the means to deal with such high-intensity mental attack skills. Old Li was silent for a while. On the side of the base, Qin Ji couldn't help but glanced at the other side when he heard that there was no sound from the communicator. Xing Mu after seeing the latter nodding his head confidently, he spoke out what he thought was absurd plan. Mr. Li Zhengmu said that he has a way to deal with these zergs. In the spaceship command room above the sky. Everyone was stunned when they heard the words. General Xiong even picked up the communicator directly. Qin Ji, what do you mean to say, the reason why you let the team we rushed in so hard to retreat is because Zhengmu has a solution to this problem. That Cheng Mu who has only been awakened for two or three months. Qin Ji, do you want to listen to what you are talking about? Ah. Uh. 
General Xiong's roar could be heard clearly even by Zheng Mu who was standing aside. He frowned slightly, reached out and took the communicator directly. I don't know who this general is, although I have only awakened for only a few months, but if you despise me because of this, then Tianji University and those other universities. University is your role model. Don't forget, right now I'm helping your military to clean up this damn mess. With that said, under the admiring gaze of everyone, Cheng Mu directly turned off the communicator. Damn it, everyone is more capable than me, a genius mechanic, that guy better pray that he doesn't have a daughter. Cursing in a low voice, Zheng Mu looked at the military professionals who had basically withdrawn from the combat area. He ordered directly to the Red Queen at the side. Let's do it. The Red Queen nodded, and there was obviously some excitement on her face at the moment. Firepower System Torrent is starting to deploy, the estimated time is 30 seconds. As soon as the Red Queen's voice fell, amidst a mechanical click, there was a slight tremor from the base under his feet and then, under the excited eyes of Zheng Mu and the shocked gaze of the others. On the top of the building of the base, dense cannon barrels suddenly rose one by one, accompanied by a burst of manipulator operation. Everyone saw with their own eyes that the yellow shells were directly loaded into the launch chamber. Red Queen's cold voice carried a certain rhythm. Patrol Eagle's reconnaissance lock has been shared, and the calculation of the melee ballistic has been completed. First torrent, launch. Next moment. Boom boom boom. The loud whistling sound shook everyone's ears, but amidst the rising gunpowder smoke, hundreds of black shadows pierced the sky and dragged a long white air current. Ugly. It has already drawn a beautiful arc. The place where it fell was the swarm of dead insects that had just withdrawn and surrounded the evacuation of the insect mother. A sharp whistling sound came from the sky above. He Guang still raised his head blankly at this moment, however, General Qi and Qin Yun Old Daoist beside him turned red with excitement. It was as if he had been looking forward to this moment. Next second. The violent explosion instantly engulfed the dense swarm of insects in front of him. The terrifying impact set off a wave of sand, and the billowing dust covered the sky and rushed towards the crowd. Wow! The huge gust of wind directly blew He Guang's head away, and amidst a whistling sound, a black shadow quickly magnified in front of his eyes. Slap! He Guang only felt as if he had been slapped across the face and sprayed shit all over his face. The viscous and foul smelling insect body fluids covered his face, and before he could retch, the dust and smoke like a sandstorm rushed over in front of him. Fortunately, there were a few people present who happened to have wind and water skills, and instantly blocked the terrifying sand and dust. However, at this moment, the sky suddenly began to rain with a foul smell, accompanied by the falling of black shadows. Pata pat pat. The crowd retreated again and again after being hit by these things. Each of them is full of doubts and curses. Damn it, what happened? Fuck, who made it, such a big commotion? is it trying to send us all to heaven together? Suddenly, everyone's movements froze, as if they had thought of something unbelievable, they lowered their heads. Sure enough, I only saw the disgusting insect limbs and broken arms all over the place at this moment. Take time with this. A minute ago, General Xiong, who was still furious because Zheng Mu dared to say that he was incompetent, hadn't had time to think about how to express it with that mother-in-law. Let go of your anger at the moment. The next moment, he was so frightened by the sudden violent explosion that he couldn't stand still. Fuck. What happened? Chapter, 70. Fuck. What happened? Everyone has this question, except for a general who has been paying attention to the situation on the light curtain, but at this moment the water glass in his hand fell to the ground with a clatter. Looking at the eyes of everyone looking over, he foolishly pointed to the light curtain in front of him. Well, is the light curtain broken? Light curtain broken? This is a kind of authority bestowed by the gods to professionals. As long as they have a vision, anyone can perform this similar screencasting behavior on the screen. How could this thing be broken? However, when everyone saw the picture in the light curtain, the same question appeared in their minds. This light curtain isn't it broken? In the picture, the originally dense swarm of insects disappeared. 
Instead, it was replaced by terrifying dust tens of meters high, completely covering the area. Although Mr. Lee was still sitting there steadily at the moment, however, he couldn't help clenching his hand holding the cane slightly. He thought of the plan Qin Ji mentioned during the communication just now. Looking at it now, it was Zheng Mu who made the move. However, even though he was used to seeing strong winds and waves, he still couldn't believe that this terrifying scene was done by a newcomer who had only awakened for two or three months. You kill the bloodthirsty praying mantis for 27, get 388 experience points, blow 20 blood drinking knife. You killed the blaster LV-25, you got 26 experience points. You kill the shield iron beetle LV-29, get 450 experience points. You killed the plague poisonous fly LV-18, and got 23 experience points. You kill. You have upgraded. Current level 421. You have upgraded. Current level 422. You have upgraded. Current level 423. You have new skills to learn. On the roof of the base, everyone's eyes were already dumbfounded, looking at the billowing smoke and dust that went straight into the sky except for the few kilometers. One by one seemed to have been immobilized. However, although the Red Queen had a little excitement on her face, she still did not forget her own job at this moment. Patrol Eagle reconnaissance activated, beginning to reconfirm the target area. The number of strike targets has been refreshed, the current remaining 22187, the proportion of annihilation is 45-46%. The second round of torrent is being deployed. The clicking mechanical arm began to reload the ammunition, and at this moment, the few people standing beside Jing Mu finally came to their senses. Kai Shinkun blushed, his mouth puffed out as if he had lost the ability to breathe. I, me, me, shit. Boss, you are a bunker. You are a bunker. Behind them, when Sang Luo and Gu Ming looked at Jing Mu, their eyes were already looking at a god. At this moment, they have already left behind the idea that an A-level mechanic is useless. What chicken ribs, does your chicken have the size of a TM Tyrannosaurus Rex? Student Jing Mu, no, boss Jing Mu, I will mess with you from now on. Go to the fucking Xingqing University. I want to go to the Southwest Military Officer. Sang Luo knelt directly on the ground, grabbing one of Jing Mu's thighs hold on. The excited voice reached the stunned Qin Ji's ears, and the latter's excited hands were shaking. Zheng Mu looked over with a half-smile. General Qin, how is it? With my level of firepower, it should be justified, right? Qin Ji blushed, but he couldn't care about anything else. He was completely overwhelmed by Zheng Mu's methods, and looked at the shells that had been loaded again in front of him. Excitedly swallowed a mouthful of saliva. This how many rounds can this fire? Zheng Mu smiled slightly, it doesn't matter how many rounds I can launch, the important thing is how many rounds these bugs can resist right now. Qin Ji nodded excitedly, just as Zheng Mu was about to fire again. A sharp hissing sound suddenly came from the billowing smoke. The next moment, an invisible gust of wind suddenly roared, and the smoke and dust were scattered in an instant. From far away, Zheng Mu and the others have already seen the bloated golden worm mother, but at this moment, its body is already full of colorful flowers. Even after the patrol eagle zoomed in on the screen, he could still see several hideous wounds on the opponent's body. At this moment, the other party was roaring towards Zheng Mu and the others angrily and painfully. It was at such a long distance that they were discovered all at once. It's a pity hit, no, move. Squeak. When Zheng Mu responded to the bully's ridicule, the golden worm mother innate again, and the next moment, the sand that was blown to pieces began to surge again. The voice behind the red came. There is a new strike target, the number of locked targets is updated, the current number is 28,700. Seeing that the other party came to summon this trick again, Zheng Mu sneered, the donkey is poor. The next moment, Queen Hong's voice sounded. Fire trajectory calculation completed. Second round of torrent, launch. The next moment, there was another burst of firepower firing scene full of visual effects, looking at the hundreds of white parabolas drawn again above the sky, and the golden worm mother in the center area of the strike target. 
a dozen pairs of disgusting eyeballs revealed obvious anger and fear. Hundreds of Zerg nearby instantly wrapped it up, building a defense with their bodies. Boom, boom, boom. As the bombing sounded again, everyone enjoyed the horrific explosion scene from the mechanic. However, Jin Mu saw that the quota was about to reach full in the blink of an eye. Facing another upgrade of experience points, he hurriedly clicked to upgrade the skills that needed to be upgraded. The opportunity to bombard monsters in pieces like today may not be encountered in the future. And the biggest consumer of experience points on him is in skills. In case the experience points on the panel reach full value, the rules will automatically upgrade him. Zheng Mu hastily used the only mechanic level skill he had obtained modular seal carving, which consumes the most experience points to upgrade. From 4-1 V2, it needs a full 100 0, 0 experience points. With experience points consumed, Zheng Mu is ready to click again to upgrade from IV2 to IVB. Hao Xian did not faint from the stimulation of the brand new numbers. Experience points for upgrading skills cannot be paid in installments, that is to say, Zheng Mu has to wait until his maximum experience points reach 1 million or more before he can upgrade this skill again. Afterwards, Mechanical Somatic Cell Transformation LV1 was upgraded to IV2, consuming 1W experience points. An upgrade from IV2 to IV3, consuming 10W experience points. The same is true for the skill life body cell transformation. TNND, this is the later stage, my experience points are all used to upgrade skills. Zheng Mu couldn't help having a toothache. It was brutal. More than 300 zero, zero skills are enough for him to upgrade to another level, but right now they are all spent on upgrading skills. However, upgrading skills is indeed very necessary. The only level module seal cutting, among other things. Module Seal Cutting 4-3, Mechanics Only Level Skill, you can use this skill to apply the skill book you have on the body of the mechanical creation, so that the opponent has the ability to use this skill, cooldown time, 12 hours. Computing Power Occupation, 150% discount for strengthening. Note, when this skill is used, it has a failure rate. The higher the seal carving level, the higher the failure rate. The 7 day cooling time has been directly reduced to 12 hours, which is a huge breakthrough. Moreover, the success rate of the skill seal cutting has also improved a lot after the skill is upgraded to 4 3. As for life somatic cell transformation, and mechanical somatic cell transformation, the subsequent skills can only be unlocked after upgrading to 4 3. The brief operation on Jing Mu's side has just ended, and the second round of shelling has just ended. Squeak. The hissing sound of the golden worm mother came immediately, making medical reform's brows slightly frowned. Is this guy provocative? Patrol Eagle reconnaissance is activated, starting to reconfirm the number of targets. The number of strike targets has been refreshed, the current remaining 20861, and the proportion of annihilation is 28-32%. The third round of torrent is being deployed. Seeing another surge of sand, many Zerg rushed out from it. In the command room of the spaceship that was still above the sky, General Xiong and the others were overjoyed to see that the Jin Huang Worm Mother summoned so many Zerg once again. Everyone's smile froze. This disgusting beast is obviously provoking, he really wants to know that such attacks can't last forever, damn it. Mr. Li, do you want to let General Qin Ji go over there and see how many rounds of such an attack Xing Mu can organize? Everyone couldn't help frowning. The support side is already on the way, but if Zheng Mu can't delay this guy, they can only use their lives to keep this family a jab, guy here as much as possible. Old Li was also pondering in his heart. With the appearance of this firepower, the evaluation in his heart has reached a new level. This is not only worthy of vigorous cultivation, but also worthy of secretly dispatching a powerful combat force to protect. His value after growing up is stronger than that of a guardian god. After all Zheng Mu's battle was never a 1v1 duel. He himself is powerful, which only means that the mechanical creations under his command are stronger. Such powerful attacks don't need to be asked. There must not be many times. I guess, one more round will be over. Mr. Li took a deep breath, and looked solemnly at General Xiong, 
who seemed to realize something, and instantly stood up straight. Please. General Xiong nodded instantly and gave a military salute. When he left here, his steps were slightly wobbly, but each step was extremely firm. Seeing that there was no movement from Zheng Mu's side, the Golden Worm Mother thought it was over, and immediately uttered a cry full of ridicule. But at this moment, in the zoomed-in screen in front of Zheng Mu, he saw that the other party was staggering, and with the help of other Zerg, he was going towards the big hole dug. The corner of Zheng Mu's mouth immediately evoked an evil smile. This guest officer is obviously dissatisfied with our service. Red Queen. Just shoot me empty. The next moment, when General Xion waved a hammer and landed on the ground with bursts of icy air. The sharp whistling sound at the top of the head sounded again. Good boy, if I survive this time by chance, I really want to have a good chat with you. General Xion sighed, and the next moment the violent explosion created a wave of air, he had no choice but to build an ice wall in front of him in an instant. Fuck. This power is too powerful. It's too fierce. The sand trembled, and the smoke and dust filled the air. However, the sharp cry of the Golden Worm Mother resounded again, causing General Xiong's heart to burst into anger. Grandma, really no one can take care of you, right? Your Grandpa Xiong is here. With a roar, before the smoke and dust cleared, his keen mental strength allowed him to instantly confirm the opponent's position, like a tiger rushing into a sandstorm. And just when General Xiong had rushed into the area for a certain distance, many Zerg who were struggling to stand up had been frozen into ice sculptures along the way. The sudden sharp whistling sound came from the top of the head again. His face changed instantly, and anxious shouts from the command room came from the communicator on his shoulder. General Xiong retreat quickly. The attack is coming. General Xiong, damn it. Waiting for your news, I have already been blasted to pieces. No matter how fast he rushed towards the Worm Mother, General Xion retreated twice as fast as before. He had just run out of the bombing area, and the next moment, amidst the violent explosion, the air wave was set off again. Wow ah ah! The whole person came to the ground with a big pendulum in the air, and half of his body was directly inserted into the sand. When he pulled himself out of the sand in embarrassment, he was in a daze. General Bear, General Bear! When more than a dozen officers with high imposing manner saw General Xion at this moment, everyone's face was slightly reddened. General Xion was so angry at this scene that he scolded his mother. Zyaxiaxiaco, don't hurry up and ask, is there any attack yet? Seeing a few of his subordinates rushing to inquire, General Xion wiped the sand off his face in embarrassment, and muttered uncontrollably as he watched the dust rise again. This level of attack can come four rounds at a time, doesn't this kid have the ability to destroy the city? However, as soon as the words fell, there was another sharp whistling sound, this time before the Golden Worm Mother could neigh, it followed quickly. General Xion was stunned, then cursed in a low voice. Fuck, it's been five rounds, are you going to heaven? You've only been awakened for less than three months. General Xion admitted that he was sour. The number of hit targets has been refreshed, Currently there are 2,671 remaining, and the annihilation ratio is 67-33%. The torrent firepower system ammunition has been emptied. On the roof of the base, I saw that after firing this round, the manipulator did not replenish ammunition as before, and the voice of the Red Queen came. Qin Ji hurriedly replied to the communicator in his hand. The attack here is over, repeat, the attack is over. Zheng Mu looked at Qin Ji with some doubts. His own panel didn't receive any news of the death of the Golden Worm Mother. That is to say, this thing was carried down again. The target has not been eliminated, what is the report to stop the attack? Zheng Mu didn't speak, snapped his fingers abruptly, and then said calmly. Red Queen, continue. Firepower Reset LV-3, was cast, and the mechanical arm of the firepower system torrent, that had just emptied five rounds of ammunition in the last second started working again. When he saw the artillery fire that had already announced the end of the attack, the next second the mechanical arm began to reload the ammunition. Qin Ji's expression suddenly changed. Zheng Mu, didn't you say that there is no ammunition after the attack? 
Zheng Mu blinked his eyes in doubt. It is true that there is no ammunition, so I am not, am I replenishing ammunition? Skills, can you use skills, but I can't. Zheng Mu's expression of you are so rare and strange, directly frightened Qin Ji to turn pale, seeing that the order to launch had been given under Zheng Mu's order. He raised the communicator in his hand and shouted hysterically over there. General Xiong retreat quickly. Withdraw quickly. The attack is coming. Withdraw quickly. Zheng Mu was stunned, and Kai Xinkuan and others standing beside him had already lost their ability to think in front of this grand scene. One by one, like wooden figures, stood behind him blankly. On the other side, after getting the news that Qin Ji's attack had ended, General Xiong and the others finally heaved a sigh of relief and looked at each other. A dozen or so troops were at least IV-60. Fang Jingrui headed towards the smoke and dust. I don't care if that guy kills me in a while. Kill the target with all my strength. After speaking, General Xiong couldn't help but look in the direction of Zheng Mu, with an admiring smile on his face. If I can come back alive, I will tell everyone I meet in the future, this kid has taken the turn of the worm mother. Chapter, 71 General Xiong and the others moved very quickly. After all, that guy, the golden worm mother, did not neigh again in the subsequent attack. Everyone was afraid that that guy would take the opportunity to run away. Several people turned into several roaring afterimages, but when they were vigilantly looking for the location of the golden worm mother, Qin Ji's hysterical scream suddenly came from the communicators on everyone's bodies. General Xiong retreat quickly. Withdraw quickly. The attack is coming. Withdraw quickly. A dozen or so people were stunned for a moment, and then their faces changed in an uproar. They didn't even dare to think about it, and quickly ran on the way back, killing their lives. Shu. The sharp whistling sound was like the whisper of the god of death, and everyone's faces were distorted in fright. Qin Ji. I hate your grandma. Rumbling explosions set off waves of air from behind. A dozen military warriors headed by General Xiong all hated their parents for giving them two extra legs. In the midst of the billowing flames at this moment, at the very moment, he was finally sent to a safe place outside by a blast of air. Bang bang. The body fell heavily to the ground, General Xiong's face was completely dark, and he pressed the switch of the communicator. Showing white teeth. Qin Ji, I will absolutely fucking kill you. I'm going to kill you. On the roof of the base, even if it is heard from the communicator, it seems to be able to turn into a real murderous aura. Qin Ji swallowed involuntarily. Numbly, he looked at Zheng Mu at the side, only to see that the latter was constantly zooming in on the patrolling eagle's detection screen in a bored state. It seemed that he wanted to find the idiot who had provoked him desperately from the second round of shelling that had already begun to overwhelm the sky. At this moment, many Feiyun boats in the sky have lowered their heights. Whether it is the staff of the assessment and supervision office, the military professionals, or the candidates participating in the assessment. All stared blankly at the scene in front of them, which was beyond their cognition. On a Feiyin boat of Hanlong University, a girl with a ponytail in a black tights and a protruding back was also standing blankly on the side of the boat at the moment. Looking at the Zerg monster that had been completely engulfed in the fierce artillery fire. Already shocked speechless. Sister Shang Yun, can that Zheng Mu really cause such a big commotion? This is too unbelievable. I'm afraid that such an attack, even a powerful professional with level IV 50 or above, won't last a few rounds, right? On the side, a girl murmured. After he Shang Yun heard the name the other party said, he instinctively frowned deeply. Silver teeth gritted secretly. That apprentice. How could he be so strong? If a mechanic is really so strong, how can he be defined as an A-level professional by Tian Dao? Thinking of this, Xian Yun felt that 627's face and the curves behind him were burning hot. At the beginning, when that guy confronted her head-on, it was fine if he had the skills to see through her stealth, but he humiliated her in front of everyone in that way. This made the proud he Xian Yun hate Qing Mu, a disciple, in his heart. He shook his head when he heard the words. Impossible. If he really has that strength, 
he only needs to show it a little in front of the teachers of Xingqin University, and he will not be reduced to the point where he chooses Southwest Military Military University that kind of disciple, next time before I can see him, I must make him look good. In the end, he Shan Yun made a creaking sound with both jade hands. On the other hand, Mr. Li no longer looked at everything at the moment. Under the protection of several people, he walked out of the command room and watched the smoke and dust billowing in the distance. Sky Mulberry's third round of torrent bombardment has already cut through the arc again, falling downward. Boom, boom. Like a series of muffled thunders exploding in the desert, violent strong winds swept across the sky. If the Feiyin boat was not strong enough and stable enough, this time, at least a lot of people would have been thrown off the boat. Old Lee was leaning on crutches, obviously looking very old, but at this moment, without anyone's support, he was standing firmly, as if he was one with the spaceship under his feet. However, at this moment, he was staring at the tumbling yellow sand, his eyes flashed brightly, as if he saw something that surprised him. Next second. Squeak. Wave after wave was more powerful, sharper, and more angry and maddened, piercing out from the sand and dust. Surprised the surrounding professionals who were on alert at the moment all changed their expressions in horror. Below, General Xiong and the others who had just narrowly escaped from death, had just caught their breath, and the next second the sharp roar behind them was so shocking that they almost didn't sit on the ground. General Xiong stared angrily, and when he turned his head, he saw the turbulent dust being blown away. The golden worm mother that had endured a full ten rounds of bombardment was exposed. This beast, this level of firepower didn't kill it completely. Damn it, I almost died under the artillery fire just now, how did this guy survive ten rounds without dying? General Xiong cursed in disbelief, and looked in the direction where Jing Mu and the others were. However, after waiting for a long time, there was no waiting for the eleventh round of artillery salvo. At the moment the base is on the roof. Not to mention the General Xiong Ajka, army, they were shocked by the toughness of this guy in front of them, even Jing Mu was a little suspicious for a while, the shells he fired were empty bombs. However, in the sight of the patrolling eagle, there are brightly colored clusters of light flickering in various colors all over the ground, flickering faintly in the sand. There are nearly 100 zero zero zerg who come and go back and forth, but they can't fake it at all. Zheng Mu couldn't help but focus the gaze of the patrol hawk on the maggot that was roaring at him. In the enlarged picture, a stink bug face that can already be described as erosive, with a mouth that has been broken off, is dripping with blood and various colorful liquids. Ha! Huh. This scene directly disgusted Zheng Mu's tactical retreat. The magnification was too high, and the projected picture was too high definition, which made Zheng Mu feel like being kissed lightly by the other party. In the dark, as if he felt Zheng Mu's gaze, a sharper roar came from the other party's mouth. In the distance, the plump body full of bug mucus moved angrily towards the direction of Zheng Mu and the others without the help of any bugs. As if he was a king who had been driven to a desperate situation, standing on the battlefield paved with the corpses of his own soldiers, roaring at the victor Zheng Mu. Come on. Kill me. Come and kill me if you have the guts. This feeling was not only felt by Zheng Mu, but even Kai Xingkuan and others around him could clearly feel it. Qin Ji took a deep breath and gritted his teeth. The Golden Worm Mother is the king of the race, she is not an ordinary boss, her intelligence is not low, Zheng Mu, if you can force it to give up escaping and choose to fight to the death here, it is already very remarkable. Leave the rest to us. Speaking of Qin Ji, he was about to pick up the communicator and communicate with the military. However, Zheng Mu didn't pay attention to the other party's reaction. Instead, he waved his hands in front of him, slowly zooming in on the picture in front of him, as if he was looking at the details of the structure of the Golden Worm Mother. Fuck! The Golden Worm Mother suddenly roared and rushed forward a few meters, but this action surprised Cheng Mu, who was observing the opponent. Seeing the looks of the people around him, especially Lang Bingyue's weird look, Cheng Mu immediately felt humiliated. Looking at the golden worm mother with her teeth and claws in the picture, she gritted her teeth. Exposed domineering. Court death. As he spoke, he waved his hand and gave the order to the Red Queen at the side. Red Empress, take out my Dejiba. Kai Shinkuan, 
Gu Feng, Gu Ming, Sang Luo, Qin Ji. Ling Bingyue, Jiang Lan Lan. Sensing the strangeness of the atmosphere, as well as the embarrassing gaze of the Red Queen, Zheng Mu slapped his forehead, Tnnd was so angry with this disgusting thing that he couldn't speak clearly. Ahem, I mean, get out my weapon. Give me a hard bang on it. Big killer. Hearing this, everyone's eyes widened. There is even a big killer. The eyes of several people looked at the position of the torrent of the fire system that was put away after running out of ammunition. After waiting for a while, the gun barrel did not appear again. But when everyone was stunned, the Red Queen gave Zheng Mu a white look, and spoke lightly. Authorization start. Weapon system necrosis laser cannon, is being released from the warehouse. As soon as the words fell, amidst the sound of machinery running, a main building of the base was suddenly split in two from the middle. Stretch out slowly. Weapon system necrotic laser cannon, order confirmed, energy compression. Buzz. There was a sound like a water pump, and then Qin Ji felt in horror that an extremely dangerous energy was being slowly compressed at the muzzle of the cannon. At the beginning, it could not be seen with the naked eye, and only a dozen seconds passed. Above the muzzle is a floating basketball deep purple energy group. Fuck, Mu, what is this? Qin Ji couldn't help pulling Zheng Mu's arm nervously at this moment. Zheng Mu didn't speak, but stared fixedly at the golden worm mother in the distance. If the opponent could withstand so many rounds of bombardment, if there was nothing special about it, Zheng Mu would never believe it. And it is precisely because of this that even if he exposes his current strongest weapon, he will definitely kill this big guy. If this kind of Zerg boss is killed by him, the explosion rate is absolutely 100%. The situation here was also noticed by all the eyes on the Feiyun boat for the first time. Among them, Mr. Lee seemed to have sensed it when the necrotic laser cannon just started to charge, and turned his head to this side in an instant. When he saw the deep purple light group at the gun barrel, gathering and growing at a speed that was almost visible to the naked eye, even this old man had to shake his head and sigh. Hey, it's true that the waves behind the Yangtze River push forward the waves ahead. If this sun can grow up, it will keep the Dragon Kingdom strong and prosperous for a hundred years. Hearing that Mr. Li suddenly gave such a high evaluation to Zheng Mu, Lu Weiqi and others who were still injured at the moment all changed their colors. Looking at each other one by one, they all saw the heart-wrenching regret in each other's eyes. If there is no one surnamed Wang, then make up your own mind. This genius who can get such a high evaluation from Mr. Li will belong to their Xingqin University. However, it was too late. Xingqin University is not only thinking about it at this moment, but as soon as possible. In order to repair the relationship with Xing Mu, he still has to think about how to deal with the next criticism from the upper management that is very likely to come. And right here, everyone has different thoughts, and there is a lot of discussion on the Feiyun boats, and the golden worm mother below seems to feel the breath of death, and roars even more frantically. When? Ding! A clear sound like a coin falling to the ground entered everyone's ears. A terrifying ray instantly hit the golden worm mother who couldn't move at all. No screams. There was no roar as expected. The rays of the scorching sun seemed to be swallowed by the deep purple rays that spanned dozens of kilometers, and the state of darkness was five or six minutes after the deep purple laser rays disappeared. It was finally returning gradually. The noise of the wind came, and the crackling high-temperature cracking sound on the sand was heard in bursts. Everyone seemed to have turned into puppets at this moment, staring blankly at the glazed tunnel that was more than ten kilometers away. Like a magic pen, a purple-colored glass painting was drawn on the bone-destroying desert. You killed the boss Golden Worm Mother IV-63, and got 244-9W experience points. You have obtained the unique skill book conservation double. You have obtained the Red Hero Level Material The Origin of the Insect Mother. You have obtained the Red Hero Level Material King Vet Egg. You have obtained the Red Hero Level Equipment Curse of the World's Disgust. You have obtained the Red Brave Consumable Brain Pill. You got an unknown corpse. You have upgraded. Current Level 424. You have upgraded. Current Level 425. You have new skills to learn. 
You broke the curse of the world one, congratulations on getting the point of heaven one. Current Tiandao point, two. A series of reminders directly filled Zheng Mu's board. Seeing the prompts from the orangutan red, Zheng Mu directly jumped down from the rooftop in place. The next moment, a liquor was already waiting below. Crash. Seeing Zheng Mu who turned into an afterimage and ran towards the place where the golden worm mother died, Qin Ji didn't say anything. Everyone knows what Zheng Mu is doing. Pick up loot. With such a large difference in level, Zheng Mu could almost be said to have killed the golden worm mother with a difference of 40 levels over his level by himself. The rewards given by the Tao of Heaven must be super generous. It was so rich that even Qin Ji and his 60 level powerhouses couldn't help drooling. However, although they were also curious about what good things Zheng Mu could get, they didn't have the slightest desire to covet them. With Mr. Li, the big man on the top, watching, he watched Zheng Mu's amazing performance throughout the whole process. As long as Zheng Mu does not betray the interests of the country and destroy the peace of the Dragon Kingdom, the road ahead is bound to be smooth. Even Lu Weiqi, who was standing behind Mr. Li, saw Zheng Mu running in the direction of the Golden Worm Mother, so he could only lower his head, not allowing himself to look at what he could see. Orangutan Red Light Group Red Brave Class, the existence of this class can no longer be measured by money. At this moment, the people who are paying attention to Zheng Mu's figure are obviously not only the official figures like Mr. Li, but the candidates from various schools on the Feiyun boat all stared wide-eyed, wanting. See what Zheng Mu looks like. However, after seeing the familiar figure of the liquor, the vast majority of people already thought of who the person on the back of the other party was. When seeing Zheng Mu's figure, He Shang Yun's body trembled violently. Obviously, the possibility that she denied before really appeared in front of her with such an incredible ending. It seems that the mechanic Zheng Mu, his mechanical creation, can actually kill a terrifying golden mother. I don't know, Reds, look at those red light clusters, Reds here are level things, even in my family, there is no one, he is as old as me. There are already so many. Hey, from now on, we are destined to be different from him. A level mechanics, tasteless. What a fucking big joke. We used to treat mechanics as a joke, and now all of us are jokes in Jing Mu's eyes. The surprise and discussion of his partners reached He Shang Yun's ears. She bit her red lips tightly, and a sentence kept echoing in her mind. Not from the same world. Chapter, 72 On Zheng Mu's side excitedly began to harvest his spoils. Under everyone's gaze, as if the strongest warrior who belonged to him was being greeted in the Colosseum, the smile on his face was already grinning to his lips. After putting away the things of the Golden Worm Mother, without even having time to check them, they headed directly to the place that had been indiscriminately bombed before. There are too many spoils, and the colorful light clusters are hidden in the sand, but thanks to the help of the rules of heaven. But he can feel the location of these things for all the trophies he has laid down. Whites don't even look at them, greens pass by, blues needs to be picky, and only purples Xing Mu doesn't refuse anyone. Ha ha ha, this kid is not polite at all. Qin Ji stood on the roof of the base, looked at Zheng Mu who was packing up the spoils from a distance, and laughed. His eyes are full of longing for the future. A super evil doer like Zheng Mu, who was born out of nowhere, joined the Southwest Military Military University, which would surely dissipate the decline of the Southwest Military Military University a lot, and it is not impossible to even revitalize it completely. Thinking of this, Qin Ji couldn't help looking at the few S-level professional geniuses on the side. However, he obviously underestimated Zheng Mu's impact on these talents. Gu Ming clenched his fists tightly and asked while suppressing his excitement. General Qin, I don't know if I reapply and register for the entrance examination of Xing Qin University and want to change to your school, is there any way? Qin Ji was startled for a moment, then nodded immediately. LOL. Ha ha ha, don't worry, as long as you want to come, we will leave the rest to our Southwest Military Military University. As for those guys from Xingqing University, what kind of strong can they teach? Come to Southwest Military Military University, and I will train you into Xingqing University from now on. We don't dare to speak of a monster like Mu. However, 
if you can stand firmly behind him and enjoy the focus of this world, then we 337 are still very confident. I heard Qin Ji say that he can stand behind Zheng Mu and enjoy the eyes of the world. Gu Ming's eyes lit up instantly, yes, this is what he wanted. The strong can only be friends with the strong, and the lion will not stand with the wild cat. They are too far away from Zheng Mu, so far that people are chasing to despair. However, Gu Ming has great expectations and impulses if he just strives for a seat as a comrade in arms to fight side by side with the opponent. And there are obviously other people who have the same idea as Gu Ming. San Luo's eyes were firm. General Qin, I also want to join Southwest Military Military University. The smile on Qin Ji's face was almost numb, and he nodded repeatedly. Then his eyes glanced in Jiang Lanlin's direction without any trace. If, if this lady is the same. Jiang Lanlan stared obsessively at Qing Mu, who was watched by tens of thousands of people in the distance, and the obsession in her eyes had not been concealed. Gu Feng on the side also admired Zheng Mu at the moment, hesitated for a moment, and moved towards Qin Ji. Well, General Qin, I still need you to talk about my family, but personally, I still want to study in your school. I am very happy to be alumni with boss Zheng Mu. Qin Ji nodded with a smile, but Gu Feng hadn't finished speaking. There was a snap. The back of the head was slapped. The latter looked at his little aunt with an aggrieved face, while Jiang Lanlan looked angry and blushed. What did you call Zheng Mu just now? Gu Feng was taken aback, boss Zheng Mu. Snapped. I got another slap inexplicably. If it was someone else, Mr. Gu would definitely beat that person to a pulp, but if this person is a little ant like Jiang Lanlan, that would be a different matter. Little ant, why are you hitting me again? Boss Jing Mu is so strong. Isn't it right to call him boss? Jiang Lanlan raised her head and hummed softly. Listen. What's your name, Boss Jing Mu? Remember, when you see Jing Mu in the future, you'll call him uncle. Everyone instantly turned into question marks. Kai Xingkuan and the others were all stunned, they never thought that Jiang Lanlan would be so bold. Lang Bingyue's pretty face turned cold instantly. It's not a good feeling to be slapped on the face. Humph, scumbag. Hearing Lang Bingyue's sarcasm, Jiang Lanlan was not afraid at all. She was slightly shorter than Lang Bingyue, and she just raised her head. Whatever you want to say, but I'll tell you, Jing Mu, I, Jiang Lanlan, have decided. Only such an amazing genius can be worthy of me, Jiang Lanlan, you are a mere A-level professional, or stay where it's cool. Lang Bingyue's eyes suddenly showed killing intent, and he sneered. I just don't know what his suitor said, the A-level professional is just a mere existence, I don't know what he will think. Jiang Lanlan suddenly became anxious, how could this woman be picky about people's language? With a cold snort, Jiang Lanlan stroked her hair, then turned to look at the nervous Qin Ji. General Qin, please help us deal with the school transfer after this assessment is over, and let me talk about it from the family. Qin Ji naturally agreed to this. This wave is so lucrative, my family. Who would have thought that the Southwest Military Military University, which was not loved by parents before, would have attracted all these S-level rookie professionals because of the sudden birth of Zheng Mu. Thinking of Lu Weiqi's grandson by his side before, he showed off in various ways that they will soon have several S-level professionals. Qin Ji wanted to raise the sky and laugh three times. Lu Weiqi. UTNND also have today. Ha ha ha, among the four S-level professionals, one committed suicide and killed himself, and the three were directly recruited by Zheng Mu to their Southwest Military Military University. This wave of them is true. They plant flowers deliberately but they don't bloom, but they plant willows and willows unintentionally to make shade. At this moment, Qin Ji's mind is full of thoughts, why he disgusted Lu Weimeng's grandsons all of a sudden. As for Kai Xingkuan and others on the side, they were already trembling in the Shura field between Ling Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan, and dared not say a word. Boy Jing Mu, the harvest is not small. I heard a voice behind me, beside Jing Mu who was instructing Thai eaters to dog plan a sandpit. Looking back, I saw an old man with a kind smile and a cane. 
Behind the other party were the guys like Lu Weiqi that he had seen before. It's just that, unlike the previous gnashing of teeth, Lu Weiqi and the others all showed a friendly smile at Jing Mu, but Jing Mu decisively ignored them. Ha, huh, good luck, old man, wait a moment, my side will be fine soon. Watching Jing Mu digging for treasure as if no one else was around. The smiles of Lu Weiqi and others froze, but Ji Lao walked over with interest. A close look at the liquor who is being dog-planed. Seeing that the other party is interested, and he must be a big shot, Jing Mu also directly unmasked the liquor's information. TSK TSK TSK, it's not just luck, old man, I haven't seen other mechanics, hey. As if thinking of some unbearable past events, Mr. Li's expression was briefly gloomy for a moment. Jing Mu could only remain silent about this. In fact, if he didn't have a system, he would most likely be the same as those mechanics who appeared before, but everyone. It is said that everyone is good. An A-level occupation recognized by the Tao of Heaven, but it is not as good as those D-level lifelike occupations, the gap between them and the ensuing ridicule around it. It is the most tormenting. At this moment, a purple light group finally appeared in front of everyone under the excavation of the liquors. Ha ha ha, boy, your baby is found. Mr. Li said with a smile, and Zheng also took it happily. A piece of purple rare grade material, after a casual look, Zheng Mu put it into his backpack. The rest of the things basically he has looked down upon. They are all things that can be bought from the trading center for money. Seeing that Zheng Mu was done, Mr. Li finally spoke with a smile. I've heard about you. Just now, President Lu of Xingqing University asked the old man to ask you. I don't know if Xingqing University will take the initiative to admit you and give you the highest standard of resource treatment. Would you like to join STI? Purity University. At the side, Lu Weiqi also hurriedly said apologetically. Student Zheng Mu, what happened before was all a misunderstanding. We have already punished the guy who ignored the rules on his own initiative. From now on, he will go to a place where no shit will happen. After all, our Xingqing University is recognized as the highest institution for professionals in the Dragon Kingdom, and the resources we get every year are also the highest. It will definitely benefit you and not harm you in the future. However, Zheng Mu curled his lips. At the beginning, he only thought that Xingqing University was the highest institution of learning, and it should be the most suitable university for him. Without even thinking about it, he directly regarded the other party as a target. Until now, he has already decided that the Southwest Military Military University is more suitable for him. While Lu Weiqi was nervously waiting for Zheng Mu's reply, a vigorous and powerful voice suddenly came from high above. What Xingqing University can give, can't our Southwest military officer not give it? Lu Weiqi was furious when he heard that someone was disrupting the situation, but when he looked up and saw the figure landing in the sky, the angry expression on his face froze on the spot. Ancient Army Zheng Mu looked curiously at this macho general who descended from the sky. He was covered with curly and exploding muscles, his upper body was exposed, and he was wearing a lacquered black military coat with general stars on it. As soon as he appeared on the stage, Lu Weiqi, the vice president of Xingqing University, was shocked to shut up obediently. Oldly, I'm still one step late. General Gu saluted Old Li respectfully. The latter waved his hand indifferently, and pointed to Zheng Mu in front of him with a smile. It's a bit late, but fortunately, our dragon country has such a great talent as student Zheng Mu, ha ha ha, it's a blessing in disguise. After speaking, Mr. Li introduced Zheng Mu with a smile on his face. You kid should have been scolding the Southwest military officer for not being tough enough before, right? This Gu Xingdong in front of you, your vice principal, you can see if he is tough enough. Zheng Mu was startled, and hurriedly bowed to the other party. The younger generation has seen the ancient predecessors, God is pitiful, Mr. Li is ruining my reputation. I, Zheng Mu, have been a Southwest military officer since I chose the Southwest Military Military University. It is my home and the second cradle of my Zheng Mu life. Absolutely no disrespectful thought. Seeing Zheng Mu's expression of I'll say the same even if you beat me to death, Mr. Li cursed with a smile and shook his head and didn't say anything else. 
but Gu Xingdong nodded in satisfaction, stepped forward and patted Jing Mu's shoulder with his palm-like palm. He glanced at the battle scene that was still rising with scorching air waves. You have done our military a favor today. I allow you to make a request. As long as it is not difficult or violates the rules, I can do it for you. Hearing this, Qin Ji, General Xiong and others who just heard the news were all shocked. Zheng Mu may not know this person's energy, but they know it all too well. What is the vice president of the Southwest Military Military University? Sorry, this is just the lowest title. Now, among the top ten protectors of the Dragon Kingdom, two of them are his disciples, so I ask you if you are strong. And the other party said that it can be done, there is absolutely no problem at all. Qin Ji and the two hurriedly winked at Zheng Mu nonstop, indicating that the other party had thought clearly and said that this opportunity is rare. However, Zheng Mu said suddenly as if he didn't see it. I really have one thing, I hope you can come forward, Principal Gu. Zheng Mu turned his eyes to Lu Weiqi and the others who were already afraid to speak, showing his sharp white teeth. I wonder if you, Principal Gu, can let us continue the unfinished assessment. What? Everyone was stunned, and Lu Weiqi and other representatives of several first-class universities all changed their expressions. Gu Xingdong glanced at Jing Mu, who was much shorter than him, in surprise, and touched his forehead. This request really caught him off guard. You sure? Zheng Mu nodded. TSK. Now, old man Li couldn't help but be surprised by Zheng Mu's aura, good guy, he really doesn't let go of any chance to kick his opponent. Looking around, look at the scene that has been in disarray, and the battle scenes that tens of thousands of people have witnessed. Continue the examination at this time. Who dares to fight you? Thinking of Zheng Mu's behavior of blocking the door at the evacuation point many times, Mr. Li couldn't help but look at Lu Weiqi and others beside him with pity. You said you guys, who is not good to offend, but why did you offend this guy who must get revenge? However, given the current value of Zheng Mu, as well as the stretching of the hips of colleges and universities such as Xingqing University in recent years, Mr. Li has no idea of interceding for these people. It's a bit of a loss. At least Cheng Mu still knows how to measure. Even if he has the killing authority, no candidate will die in his hands. Thinking of this in his heart, Mr. Li nodded and led the people towards the direction of the spaceship. Zheng Mu looked at Lu Weiqi and the others who were gnashing their teeth but looked helpless, and smiled slightly. I'm sorry, President Lu, I'm not interested in Xingqing University, but I'm very interested in making Xingqing University uncomfortable. When Zheng Mu returned to the base, the scorecard on his body sent a notice about the continuation of the assessment. Candidates who were still in the examination room felt helpless and began to move towards the evacuation point. And the examinees around the battle scene saw Zheng Mu showing off his might, but when they heard about it, they still had to take the exam. One by one, they ran wildly in an instant. Heading towards the evacuation point is a reckless advance. Hurry up! Those grandsons from Xingqing University have provoked Zheng Mu, and that guy is going to block the door. Go to fucking Sanqing University, I'm a fucking candidate, they provoked Zheng Mu, and they have nothing to do with me. Ah! People in the desert and the sky shook their heads when they saw this absurd scene. Lu Weiqi even made a plop and knelt down in front of Mr. Li. Mr. Li, Mr. Li, you can't leave us alone. If Sheng Mu keeps going like this, we won't be able to recruit a single candidate this year. Yes, yes, Mr. Li, if our enrollment is zero this year, then, the whole world will watch our jokes. Mr. Li, please help us. Looking at the representatives of the various schools kneeling on the ground, Mr. Li's expression was extremely cold. To be seen as a joke by the whole world? Hee <laughs> hee, haven't we already been a joke? It's been a few years, and for several years in a row our newcomers have failed miserably in international competitions. Did you realize that you are afraid of being seen as a joke at this time? It's not just Cheng Mu who is going to slap you in the face today, but also everyone in Longguo. Old man, I can't wait to slap you to death. When he was in front of Zheng Mu, Mr. Li was a humorous and unassuming old man next door. However, in front of these people, the overwhelming coercion showed that the old man in front of him was an extremely ferocious tiger. 
Put away your arrogance and incomprehension that you don't know where it came from. Chapter, 73 In the Roaring Roar The base vehicle is heading towards the extraction point. Along the way, the expressions of the examinees who were running for their lives changed drastically when they saw Zheng Mu's iconic terrifying chariot. I wish I could grow a pair of wings on the spot and stay away from each other. However, under the surveillance of the patrol eagles, there is no possibility of hiding the whereabouts of these people at all. Soon, under the pursuit of liquor and T-800, the score card was handed over. In the base car. However, at this moment, in the eyes of outsiders, it should be Zheng Mu who is enjoying glory and status, and is being sought after by others. But the needle sticks in the seat, like a light on the back, like a thorn in the throat. Mu big brother, you must be tired, let me give you a shoulder squeeze, I have learned which robots I have and use. Humph, why not let the robot press it directly? It's unnecessary. Hee <laughs> hee, what do you know, our poor student Ling Binyue must have never been in a relationship, right? A robot can press it, so can it be the same as a girl's? Zheng Mu was sitting on the sofa, and behind her was Jiang Lan Lan who was acting very intimately, wishing to hang her whole body on Zheng Mu's body. The aura of female hooligans rushing towards her made Zheng Mu a little hard to resist. What made him even more uncomfortable was that Ling Binyue was sitting on the sofa opposite him at the moment. Judging him with a complex look full of resentment, anger, blame, and pity. As if to say. Your father has already been sorry to my mother, should you also be sorry to me? Gone. He wished that the golden worm mother would live again, fight with him for three hundred rounds, and have a wave of confrontation between the two armies between the mechanical creation and the zerg, and he didn't want to face the current catastrophe. Fortunately, when necessary, this brother Kai Shinkuen can always come to the rescue in time. Boss, we are going to the evacuation point. Suddenly, my eyes lit up. He stood up with a splash and walked outside. Leng Bingyue snorted coldly at Jiang Lan Lan, but quickly followed Jing Mu, but unconsciously, the distance between the two became closer and closer. Zheng Mu glanced at this Tsundra girl amusedly, feeling very proud. Aren't you arrogant? Now you finally know what a sense of crisis is. Outside, when Zheng Mu's familiar huge base vehicle slowly rose from the horizon and appeared near the evacuation point the first time it was discovered by the other 19 candidates of Southwest Military Military University who were waiting here. Boss Zheng Mu is back. I don't know who yelled, and in the next second, everyone who had been resting after a series of battles stood up one after another. When they saw the familiar chariot, everyone couldn't help but greeted it excitedly. Not far behind them is the Sand City. Although they did not witness the battle that took place in the center of the desert, they had already learned about it from the defenders of Huangsha City and the candidates who had returned from elimination. They were shocked when they heard that Jin Yeo, with a team of only a few people, fought against a thousand, and candidates from other colleges, crying for their father and mother, scurrying around in the desert. When an IV-63 level Zerg boss appeared in the desert, the strength of the military here was not enough to suppress it immediately, but it was killed by Zheng Mu alone. They are numb. When Zheng Mu's base vehicle slowly stopped in front of the evacuation point, everyone consciously exposed a large open space. There was a burst of mechanical sound. The base car turned into a building mode, and Zheng Mu's figure appeared on the roof of the base, which was also in the spotlight. Long live Boss Zheng Mu. It's awesome, boss, we will mess with you from now on. Whoa, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I really want to be Boss Zheng Mu's girlfriend, I'm also an A-level professional, I. Don't think about it, your A-level occupation is the same as the A-level occupation of Boss Zheng Mu. Hey, I heard that Ling Binyue and Boss Cheng Mu grew up together, and the two are so close now, maybe they are already a couple. Not to mention, if it's a normal relationship, do you think Goddess Binyue will give up Xingqing University and choose to follow our boss to the Southwest Military Attaché? Looking at the crowd of more than two zero zero people cheering and shouting for him, Cheng Mu didn't have any special emotions. After all, he has also experienced the scene where thousands of people shouted before. He winked at Kai Shinkuen who was beside him, and the latter immediately understood. Everyone line up, the boss is going to start distributing savings to you. 
As soon as these words came out, the audience was even more ebullient, almost in the blink of an eye, a long queue was neatly lined up in front of the gate of the base, and everyone excitedly held their point cards. Like groupies waiting for their idol's autograph. Zheng Mu came out from the base and took the scorecard from the person in front of him. Grade A Gravekeeper, Heng Shanha, 4,771 points. Zheng Mu glanced at him slightly in surprise. To be able to score more than 4,00 points in this peripheral area must have put in a lot of effort. Although it is still far from the 900 admission points of the previous session, Zheng Mu still nodded in satisfaction. Good. He doesn't mind giving these people a hand without affecting his ranking. But if these people are really bad, he will definitely feel uncomfortable. Hearing Zheng Mu's simple compliment, Hang Shanha blushed with excitement. Then he was shocked to see that 10 0, 0 points were directly transferred to his point card by Zheng Mu. After entering university, work hard, A level professionals are no worse than S level professionals. Zheng Mu said lightly, causing everyone in the line to nod excitedly. If it was someone else who said this, they would definitely spit on each other's face immediately. Why is S class S class? The attack power and boost of other skills, as well as the magnificence of the skill tree, are A level professionals comparable. However, the person who said this was an A level professional who overthrew a group of S level professionals, and even forcibly killed Jing Mu, who was a 40 level boss higher than his own level. Then the result is completely different. Zheng Mu is just a word, which is to let them all regard it as the truth. Zheng Mu transferred points to these people one by one. 10 0, 0 points per person, plus what they earned from fighting monsters during this period, basically around 12,300 points. It is safe to enter the Southwest Military Military University. Behind him, Sang Luo and other S-level professionals all showed envy and admiration when they saw this. Although their point cards have been taken away by Zheng Mu, they are considered eliminated. But who made them S rank? After deciding to follow Zheng Mu to the military attaché in the Southwest, they didn't care about anything. Southwest Military Attaché University will take care of everything, and they just need to wait quietly for the notification to enter the school. Shameless. Impossible. Absolutely impossible. In the spaceship command room above the sky. When Qin Ji told the news that Sang Luo and the others had decided to join their Southwest Military Military University with a smile on his face. Lu Weiqi, who was already in a bad mood, was so angry that he jumped up. However, looking at Lu Weiqi who was roaring hysterically like an old lunatic, Qin Ji's face was full of schadenfreude. Hee hee, President Lu, Southwest Military Attaché University is not asking for your opinion, but notifying you. Qin Ji no longer cared about his image. A while ago, this old man was like a mangy dog, taunting him all kinds of things, no different from the old hooligans on the street. Now he has also directly transformed into a real villain, looking at Lu Weiqi who was so angry that his body was swaying, he sneered. Principal Lu, do you still want to force those S-level newcomers to stay? They applied for your Xingqing University just because of your number one title. Looking at your faces now, and looking at your strength, I feel that you are not worthy of your name. They are all embroidered pillows. Shouldn't you be looking for reasons in yourself for choosing our Southwest Military Military University? Lu Weiqi was so angry that his teeth were chattering. Pointing at Qin Ji and others was a curse. Fart. Your Southwest Military Military University has been getting worse and worse over the years, so it should show that you have no strength. You guys who only know how to be brave and ruthless how could it be possible? New B. As he spoke, Lu Weiqi turned his attention to Mr. Li who was quietly watching the play. Mr. Li, they are going too far. Now it's okay to humiliate us in a different way, but they still want to poach our students. This is intolerable or unbearable. You have to decide for us. Looking at Lu Weilu, who is old and has a nose and tears. Even if it was Mr. Lee, a coldness flashed in the depths of his eyes at this moment. If the vice president of Xingqing University is like this, how can you expect other people to be better? On the side, Gu Xingdong folded his arms around his chest, looking at Lu Weiqi, who was sobbing, with undisguised contempt in his eyes. 
Hearing the other parties begging for grievances, he shook his head. It's true that we at the Southwest Military Military University can't train good seedlings to become trash like you. But we can turn them into strong men who can teach you guys to shut up with your fists. Mr. Lee is also not interested in watching such a shameful farce. He stood up and said calmly. Except for those who pass the assessment and enroll in accordance with the established procedures, all those who are eliminated will be reorganized for a new assessment. Having said that, Mr. Lee paused slightly. Enrolling in a school can also allow them to choose again. Now, except for the people from the Southwest Military Military University who looked proud, the representatives of the other nine first-class universities all looked desperate. They understand that today's first-class universities like them are probably not just as simple as being a laughing stock. Outside Huangsha City, the time seems to be coming to the end of the assessment. Chi Tai and Qingyun Laodao looked at the lively scene outside the evacuation point with a look of spectator, and they both looked at each other with low smiles. My little friend Jing Mu, I'm afraid I will be hated by those old things in the future, ha ha ha. When a lion becomes a lion king, there are bound to be obstacles on the road, but bones are everywhere. No matter how unhappy they are, what can they do, and deal with a little baby by themselves when they are old? As for the senior professionals they cultivated, he he. When Chi Tai said this, he really couldn't hide his disdain. If it is said that the proud sons of heaven in the eyes of others were indeed able to represent the new power of the dragon kingdom, the appearance of Zheng Mu now will inevitably pull those guys down from the altar. The so-called genius, in front of Zheng Mu, is not even worthy of lifting shoes. Outside the base, Zheng Mu looked at those professionals coming in mighty force in the picture, and then at a position more than ten miles away from the base, those professionals who were hesitant to move forward had mocking smiles on their faces. Are these guys innocent? Very innocent. But that can only blame them for being unlucky, having a group of bullying school representatives and meeting Zheng Mu, a real villain who is sure to get revenge. Red Empress, let's have a wave of fireworks, and welcome our guests who have come from afar. After finishing speaking, on the roof, the firepower system torrent, that once took turns serving the mothers of Jin Huang worms rose slowly again. Looking at the filled shells, Kai Shinkuan and the others silently covered their ears. The next moment, in a burst of violent roar. In the distance, the people who were hesitant to launch an assault on Zheng Mu, who was stuck there, were shocked to see hundreds of white parabolas roaring above the clear sky. Damn it! Run! The sound of piercing through the air came at an extremely fast speed, the next second. The violent explosion set off a terrifying sand wave more than 10 meters high on the spot. But Cheng Mu is not a mad murderer, the scope of the bombing is above the open space in front of them. After a burst of smoke and dust dissipated, more than a dozen small sand dunes directly turned into a large sand pit with rising heat waves. Nearly 10,000 professionals gathered here slumped on the ground in despair. This, this level of attack can that guy also be assessed with us. Mom, the mechanic is too cruel, too cruel, if this mother really wants to beat me, I won't even have scum left 840. No, this guy is stuck here, even if he charges, he can't get through, what should we do? Just when everyone was desperate and at a loss, there was another sharp whistling sound. White's Ark landed on the desert behind them this time. Rumbling. Some people finally collapsed and burst into tears. Boss, accept the supernatural powers. I surrender. I admit defeat, what kind of bullshit is Xingqin University, I won't be able to get into it. Fuck Beiwu University. They can let go of this monstrous existence, and I won't go to the blind school. Brother Zheng Mu, don't fight, don't fight. In the picture of the patrol eagle, seeing that the fire is almost ready, AT-800 in the base finally rushed over there with sacks one by one. When they saw the T-800 and the others coming to collect the point cards, everyone seemed to be afraid that they would be a step too slow, and that Zheng Mu would launch that terrifying attack again. Hastily handed over his points card. When the news that all candidates were wiped out and eliminated by Zheng Mu alone was directly transmitted back through the screen. Lu Weiqi and others in the command room were all ashamed. It's over. Liang Jindong, the vice president of Beiwu University, suddenly stood up, raised a stool beside him, and threw it at Lu Weiqi, 
who was beside him. There are eyes but no pearls. There are eyes but no pearls. Eyes but no pearls. Lu Weiqi was stunned by the opponent's beating, and when he heard the opponent's reprimand, he burst out with affection. Go to Nima. How good can your Beiwu ones be? Isn't that the same as rejecting Zheng Mu, I'll give you a punch. Ignoring the messy scene here, when Zheng Mu completed all the points cards. The number on his point card jumped directly to more than 80 million. For these people behind, most of the points are in the range of 8 or 9,000. Give me your points card. Zheng Mu brought over the score cards of Leng Bingyue and Kai Xinkuan. Just swipe and pull. A level cold wind swordsman, Leng Bingyue, 1200 W points. B class golden gun shooter Hua Xinkuan, 1162 W points. As for Zheng Mu, he reserved 66 W points for himself, which is auspicious. Hey, since I got Bingyue, I, as a gay friend, can only take a back seat to the second tier in the boss's heart. Kai Shinkuen couldn't hold back the smile on his face, but he was talking about women's literature in a resentful manner. On the side, Leng Binyue pursed her red lips tightly, looking at the numbers on the scorecard, Xia Fei's cheeks, and Xiang Lanlan rolled her eyes. Cut, isn't it just points? It doesn't matter how many there are. I don't have points but I can still go to Southwest Military Military University. The sour words this time did not arouse the slightest anger of Leng Binyue, who seemed to have made some big decision suddenly. When Zheng Mu was caught off guard, he stepped forward suddenly, and quickly dodged away. Feeling the rapidly fading warmth, Zheng Mu couldn't help but shook his head with a smile. With this girl's character, she might go crazy again after recovering. Chapter, 74 Under the direct influence of Zheng Mu, a shit-stirring stick. This year's assessment of first-class university newcomers and professionals definitely left a big mark in the history of Long Kingdom. Among the tens of thousands of candidates, except Southwest Military Military University, where more than 200 people passed the pass, all other universities, even Xingqin University, which is known as the number one in the Dragon Kingdom, were all wiped out. Ha ha ha, 66 W points, you are actually a fastidious person, don't worry, since you are the winner of this first-class assessment, then Southwest Military Military University will not miss you with corresponding rewards. Well, there are also the rewards of Kai Xinkuan and Ling Bingyue, and there will be no less. In Huangsha City, just as the assessment was announced to be over, Qin Ji and the others approached Qing Mu immediately. Seeing their excited appearance, and Sang Luo and others following behind, Mu has already thought of what happened. With a slight smile, he said to several people. Welcome, it looks like we are still really classmates. Several people nodded one after another. Besides Sang Luo and the others who had transferred S-level professionals, there were also a few people who were so excited that they couldn't find their way. Boss Jing Mu, why did I become the fourth place? I can't take this reward. General Qin, we have to rely on Boss Jing Mu to get into school. We have already taken a huge advantage, how can we still get the ranking award? Yes, yes, Boss Jing Mu, I am very ashamed to be the fifth place, the reward is still for you. But among the two zero zero people who were taken away by Zheng Mu, the seven people with the most points. Because apart from the Southwest Military Military University, none of the other universities passed the assessment this year, so the top ten places naturally all belonged to the other two zero zero people from the Southwest Military Military University. However, this is a direct rocking cart. Take what is given to you. If you slack off when hunting outside, this ranking will not be your turn. Several people wanted to say something, but Zheng Mu had already walked away. Not because of anything else, after getting the winner of this assessment. His promotion task was finally completed. The promotion task has been completed, and rewards are being issued to you. Congratulations on obtaining the Red Brave Class Blueprint Magic Battle Puppet Robot Mirage. Inside the base car room. When Zheng Mu heard the rewards from this system, he sat up from the bed with a bang. Mirage? Damn, it can't be the Mirage I know. He hurriedly turned on the system to check the latest drawings. Red 547 Color Hero Class Magic Battle Puppet Robot Mirage. 
Manufacturing Requirements, Soul of Satan Magic Armor Library 1, Advanced Intelligence Core Mirage Strauss 1, Bionic Human Muscle Tissue 1, Nano Array Skin Defense System 1, Magic Power 1. Hiss. Looking at the simulated finished product beside the blueprint, Jing Mu gasped. Isn't that intellectual beauty big sister with a cute ball head, a lady's attire, and long silver hair, the mirage in his impression? Elegant and intellectual in daily life, violent and hot in battle. No, no, I'm going to have a nosebleed. When Zheng Mu thought that he would have such a super beautiful woman by his side in the future, he couldn't help showing his original shape in an instant. Fuck. I must get my mirage out as soon as possible. Although the lowest level materials on this are all purple rare level existences, several of them even have red brave level. But with the energy of the Southwest Military Military University, it shouldn't be difficult to find materials that can be used for transformation. Etc. Suddenly Zheng Mu seemed to think of something. Damn it! My current Golden Touch LV3, can only transform materials that do not exceed the purple rare level, isn't that? Zheng Mu's face changed wildly, and he hurriedly opened his skill tree panel. When I upgraded to 423 before, I had new skills unlocked, and after I killed the Golden Worm Mother, I was promoted to LV25, and I unlocked new skills. He hadn't had time to look yet. As soon as I opened it, I saw four skills that were shining with light. Golden Hand LV1, point the Golden Hand promotion skill, which can transform monster materials, or materials and other items that do not exceed the Red Brave level into mechanical components with similar properties, cooling time, 24H. Computing power occupies 150% discount for computing power enhancement, 50% discount for Golden Hands. Just the first unlocked skill made Jing Mu's expression slightly relieved. Fortunately, the ability to handle higher level materials has finally been unlocked. That's what the computing power occupies. Zheng Mu's teeth are a little sore, even after partial reduction and offset, it still needs to consume another 100 points of computing power. Zheng Mu looked at his panel, distressed. Next skill. Smart Component Upgrade IV-1 the smart core can be programmed and upgraded to improve the performance of smart components, so that the response of mechanical creations is closer to that of an independent individual. Cooling time, 1 day. Computing power occupation, 20-50% discount for strengthening. Note, the higher the level, the higher the upgrade failure rate of smart components. This is the skill of the intelligent core of Qianji mechanical creation. Zheng Mu gasped. A mechanical creation without an intelligent core and autonomous consciousness needs to consume the computing power of a mechanic. Now that I am learning a skill, I have to calculate carefully, so I don't have extra computing power to use on mechanical creations. However, the materials required for smart components are the most difficult to drop among all monster materials. And related materials above the purple rare level are also quite sought after in other life professions. Hey, with this skill, wouldn't I be able to upgrade the green excellent level intelligence core to blue in the future, and then from blue to purple, red. Tough. As for the failure rate in the note, Zheng Mu completely ignored it. If there is no failure rate, then it is nonsense, but the failure rate is nothing more than a mere failure rate, which can be regarded as an additional channel for obtaining the main components. The remaining two skills are new skills developed by the mechanical cell, branch. Mechanical Inner Cabin LV1, a special warehouse for mechanical creations can be opened in the body to store daily mechanical creations. The current vacant space is 33, and there is no cooling time. Computing Power Occupation, 20-50% discount for strengthening. Note, the mechanical creations placed in the cabin will no longer have the ability to share damage for the mechanic. Shadow Mechanics V1 Construct a shadow machinery space, open up a hiding space for mechanical creations in the shadow of the mechanic, for combat and daily use, the target must have dark attribute skills, no cooldown time. Computing power occupation, 20-50% discount for computing power enhancement. Study. All are very practical skills, and those who do not hesitate to choose to learn. With all of these skills lit up, Zheng Mu has just entered into a state of incompetence in the blink of an eye because of the increased computing power that has just been upgraded to 425. Name, Zheng Mu. 
Occupation, A-Level Mechanic. Level, 425-0150-W. HP, 8500-8500. MP, 500-500. Strength, 104. Agility, 103. Mental Power, 76. Constitution, 105. Skills, Combat Analysis IV-3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Golden Hand LV-1, Firepower Reset LV-3, Ordnance Transformation LV-3, Computing Power Enhancement LV-3, Mechanical Cell LV-3, Nano Magnetic Field Scanning LV-3, Module Seal Cutting IV-2, Ghost Step IV-3, Biological Scanning LV-3, Nanomechanical Wave IV-3, Mechanical Body Cell Transformation 3, Life Source Cell Transformation LV-3, Smart Component Upgrade IV-1, Mechanical Inner Cabin LV-1, Shadow Machinery Factory. Mechanical Creations, Transformers Base, Transformers Optimus Prime, Liquor 40, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-838, 3D District Handmaiden 2, Patrol Eagle 500, Bomb Beetle 100. Zheng Mu couldn't hide his excitement at the brand new panel. With the end of the matter in Huangsha City, Zheng Mu and the others finally ushered in the day when they entered Southwest Wuji University. Zheng Mu put the base car into the storage backpack behind him, followed the joyful Qin Ji and others, and boarded the first city to the Dragon Kingdom. Shindu. Crash. One second, I and others were still in the dusty yellow sand city, and the next second they disappeared with the light of the teleportation array. Opening their eyes again, Zheng Mu and the others were already in a magnificent city. No Ajf, not the city. This is Southwest Military Military University. Looking at the high-rise buildings, there were clear signs of Southwest Military Military University and the numbers of various floors, and his mouth opened wide in surprise. Ha ha ha, to make our mechanical god of war Zheng Mu show such an expression, it seems that our Southwest Wuji University is not too bad. Qin Ji has been paying attention to Zheng Mu's reaction, but obviously, Zheng Mu's reaction at the moment is very satisfying to him. Looking at the other people one by one, they all looked around in surprise. Qin Ji personally began to explain Southwest Military Affairs University. Our Southwest Military Attaché University is committed to cultivating truly strong men who can fight well, and our Dragon Kingdom military is behind it, so after you enter here today, you must remember the first iron rule here. Qin Ji stretched out a finger solemnly. Every word. Strength is respected. Zheng Mu nodded, this rule suits his appetite very much, this is the spirit that a professional should have, this rule created by launching Tian Dao is not for cultivating rice worms. Seeing that everyone's expressions became solemn after hearing this rule, Qin Ji nodded. He pointed to the tall buildings behind him. Southwest Military Military University is divided into three campuses, you can also think of it as the third, sixth and ninth grades of Southwest Military Military University. The three campuses from low to high are the lieutenant campus, the school has campus and the highest general officer's campus. Hearing the names of these three campuses, everyone immediately felt a strong sense of austerity. Zheng Mu murmured in his heart. Isn't it indeed the Southwest Military Attaché University, which has the same spirit as the military? It turns out that the grades assigned are all based on the military. Zheng Mu looked around. As a first-class professional university, the students recruited by Southwest Military Military University are at least B-level professionals, and most of these people are lieutenants in the army. In other words, the Southwest Military Attaché University is training these newcomers according to the military model. It just changed the environment from the original military camp to the current university. Qin Ji was still talking to everyone in front of the stage. The higher the level of the three campuses, the materials and equipment subsidies they can receive every month are different, and for the students of different levels of campuses, our resource management office will give different exchange lists. If any of you can step into the level of the general officer campus one day, then you must go to the resource treasure house there, hee <laughs> hee. At the end, Qin Ji couldn't help but grinned and laughed. This kind of appetizing behavior directly got Jing Mu's speechless eyes. He raised his hand, Qin Ji immediately nodded. General Qin, how can I upgrade from a low-level campus to an advanced campus? 
I want to know if there is any need for qualifications or other processes. Hearing this, Qin Ji suddenly became serious after laughing out loud. Here, I'm going to repeat the first iron rule I mentioned just now, strength is respect. This rule is not limited to you students. In the future, the teacher who will be responsible for your various subjects, if you think that his ability is insufficient, or some guys with bad conduct try to touch you, boldly beat him back. As long as you can beat that teacher down, you can directly decide whether he will stay or not, and have the right to recommend the next candidate for his original position. Now, even Zheng Mu cursed inwardly when he heard this rule. No matter what Qin Ji said outright, there are scumbag teachers in the Southwest Military Military University. It also directly explains the power of the winner after overthrowing the teacher. All the people present smell the strong smell of the Colosseum. That's right, the Colosseum. Wolves eat meat, dogs eat shit. The weak here will inevitably have a very miserable life, and Zheng Mu has reason to believe that this rule is very likely to be one of the reasons for the decline of Southwest Military Military University. Once those who did not persist, chose to drop out and leave. What good things do you expect them to say about Southwest Military Attaché University? Seeing that everyone was stunned by the rules he said, Qin Ji continued as if he had expected it a long time ago. Strength represents everything here, and therefore, as Zheng Mu said just now, the promotion of the campus level is also directly linked to strength. Among the Southwest Military Military University, there is no mention of dragon coins here. The only thing that is circulated and recognized is contribution points. You can gamble with your opponents in the arena, and the winner will get contribution points. You can accept the mission of going out and suppressing in cooperation with the military, and you can get contribution points when you complete the mission. Of course, Southwest University also supports some of you as life professionals, using the equipment, potions, and some combat props you made to exchange for contribution points. In addition to exchanging at the resource management office, you can also trade contribution points in private. After rattling a lot of important things, Qin Ji paused slightly. Finally, there is one more thing that you must know, and it is also a model that is found in all major universities today. Guild. Zheng Mu was taken aback for a moment. He knew this. Not only did professional guilds exist in the outside world, but guilds existed even more frequently in major colleges and universities. However, every time something about the professional guild in the university broke out, it was not a good thing. Either he was killed in the confrontation between the two guilds, or the second society exploited and squeezed the new professionals, and finally a tragedy happened. And Qin Ji nodded after seeing the changes in everyone's expressions. In my Southwest Military Attaché University, although the guild is under very strict supervision and there will be no such news events that you have seen, but on one point, we encourage the guild. Qin Ji slowly spit out a noun. Guild battle. If any of you in the same campus want to establish a guild, you'd better do your research in advance. Once your guild is established, the monthly resources of all guild members will be bundled and converted into guild resources. At this time, you will face challenges from other guilds in the same campus. You have the right to refuse the challenge, but if you refuse, your guild resources will be deducted by 20% next month. That is to say, if you reject the challenge five times in a row, everyone in your guild will not be able to receive any resources that should belong to you from the resources. Chapter, 75 Because there are really not many people enrolled this year, or because Zheng Mu and a group of S-level professionals are also among them. It was rare for Qin Ji to take all of them through the enrollment procedures, receive their personal documents, and assign classes and dormitories before leaving. Boss, it sounds like the Southwest Military Military University is really very strict. According to the address in his hand, Kai Shinkuen said with a worried expression as he watched the signposts walking in the lieutenant campus of Southwest Military Military University, which was like a city. Zheng Mu nodded. Along the way, he can see a lot of billboards, and street shops. However, the shops here are somewhat special. Murloc Guild, one pot of fresh fish stew in the world. Blood Wind Guild, customization of swords and weapons. Yufei Guild, cloth armor monopoly. This place is really no different from the commercial street, except for one thing, 
all the shops here have a guild background. After a little thought, Jing Mu had already figured out the key point. What is the meaning of the guild's existence? To unite the surrounding forces to form a group of forces, so as to achieve the purpose of self-protection and exploitation of others. However, without enough benefits, how can you expect people in the guild to contribute to the guild's affairs, or to recruit more members? At least, after joining the guild, all guild members will receive more resources than the school originally distributed to them every month, otherwise, the guild would have no need to exist. And this directly created the somewhat weird guild commercial street. Earn extra money for the guild, thereby improving the cohesion of guild members. TSK TSK TSK, it's really weird, but it seems that in Southwest Military Military University, it's really not easy for a single person to improve himself with peace of mind. Zheng Mu and Kai Shinkuan paused, and they came out at the intersection of a street, on a square arena, the two were fighting back and forth, and there were a lot of people watching around. In midair, a light curtain displayed the information of this competition. B-level Hynix Chiohua, fighting against A-level magician Yi Sang. Gambling, 100 contribution points. Well, I ran into someone who gambled so quickly. Qin Ji told them before that it's not just that challenges between guilds cannot be rejected all the time. Individuals in the same class cannot refuse multiple times, and if they refuse more than three gambling fights within a month, they will face the end of being cleared of resources. Kai Shinkuan obviously became nervous, not because he was afraid of being challenged by others, but because they seem to be targeted. Are you newcomers this year? A man with at least a cup came over, looked Zheng Mu and the others up and down, and asked suddenly. Zheng Mu frowned and nodded. Any questions? Hearing this, the man immediately showed a strange and enthusiastic smile. Let me introduce myself. My name is Guo Mingpeng, for 38, level B level boxer. Since you are newcomers, you must not have joined the guild. Do you want to join our Iron King Guild? Not only do you have various contribution points and benefits, but you will not need them in the Weiguan campus from now on. Worry about being bullied. However, Zheng Mu has already seen the other party's true thoughts from the other party's clumsy expression. There are some benefits to contribute, but it is definitely not something you can get by doing nothing every day. Maybe they will use various reasons to swallow all the resources that should belong to them. And you don't need to be bullied by others in the lieutenant campus, and the others here obviously don't include themselves. Sorry, we're not interested. Zheng Mu shook his head, pulled Kai Shinkuan and walked forward. The other party was rejected, and did not continue to persuade. Instead, he looked back at Zheng Mu and his back, eyes full of greed. Boss, I feel that this guy obviously won't let it go, and I'm afraid he will target us. Kai Shinkuan said nervously, Zheng Mu nodded naturally. They have unknowingly arrived at their own dormitory building, no. D dormitory building in Weiguan campus, a dormitory building that looks very controlled. Southwest Military Military University did not recruit enough students, and naturally the dormitory building was also dissatisfied. The dormitories of Zheng Mu and Kai Shinkuan are adjacent to each other, and the conditions of the dormitories are not worthy of praise. Single apartment style, complete water and electricity, internet connection, nothing more. Zheng Mu frowned slightly. This condition is not as good as the conditions in his base car. The most important thing is that this place is too small. If he wants to release Tifa and the others to serve him, it will make this place look a bit crowded. Needless to say, sometimes he has to study mechanical creations, which is too big to fit. TSK TSK TSK, this Southwest Military Military University really knows how to play, it's encouraging competition openly and secretly. However, when he thought of the Guomingping he met on the road just now, and the eyes of many greedy people who seemed to have seen prey along the way, Xing Mu took a deep breath and came to the edge of the balcony. The view here is good, and you can see some sparkling seas from a distance. Xing Mu's eyes suddenly became sharp. That's the decision. If you want to improve yourself with peace of mind and do what you want to do, you must show enough strength. Zheng Mu muttered, if it was in the wild, he would release the base directly, let alone a professional. Even this lieutenant's campus, he can raise it to the ground. 
but this is obviously not appropriate. Then the mechanical creations I can use right now are Optimus Prime, T-800 and Liquor. At this moment, Jingmu suddenly realized that before he knew it, the mechanical creations at hand were not enough. Whether it's the T-800 or the Liquor, it's better to deal with the newcomers, but it's worse to deal with the old fritters of the Southwest Military Military University. Maybe it's because I have experienced so much fighting a group of enemies alone that even Zheng Mu instinctively forgot when he was thinking about the problem. A group arena is not a group of opponents. The T-800 and liquor in his hands, in a one-on-one -on -one situation, might not be the opponents of the professionals here, but they rushed forward. In the entire lieutenant campus, it is really rare that anyone can walk down from his arena. Just thinking quietly on Zheng Mu's side, thinking about how to get rid of all the troubles once and for all, when the special mobile phone that was just issued in his pocket suddenly rang. Then, it was Leng Bingyue who called. Zheng Mu, where are you, something happened on our side, someone wants to force us to join the guild. Zheng Mu's eyes instantly turned cold, and after asking them where they were, he hung up the phone. What a bunch of impatient guys. The corners of Zheng Mu's mouth curled into an arc. In a sense, this place is really a very nice place. When Kai Shinkuan learned that there were newcomers of their class so soon, and was targeted by the old fritters, and that his boss girlfriend was among them, he was furious. His grandmas, the nine first-class universities in the bone-swallowing desert have been overthrown by us, are you afraid of them bastards? But when Zheng Mu and the others arrived near the dormitory where Ling Bingyue and the girls lived, there were already quite a few people around. Jing Mu saw Ling Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan from the crowd at a glance, and what surprised Jing Mu even more was that besides these two, he also saw an acquaintance. He Shang Yun. Beauty, ask around, our Sea Dragon Guild is the most powerful in the lieutenant campus, and the treatment is nothing to say, you can only receive resources worth 500 contribution points from the school a month, but as long as you join us, starting at 1000 a month. That's right, little sister, you see, Brother Jia came here in person for you, and Brother Jia is the most daring to make a move. Not to mention that Brother Jia's strength is second to none in the kitchen school district. Join us beauties, you won't regret joining us. A large group of people gathered here, and Leng Bingyue and the others were not given a chance to leave. Zheng Mu's face was icy cold, and Kue Shinkuan at the side even took out his weapon directly. Da da da. Get the fuck out of my way. Haven't you heard that a good dog doesn't get in the way? Kai Shinkuan may not be as strong as the old fritters from the Southwest Military Military University, but after following Zheng Mu from the Desert of Swallowing Bones, he has definitely mastered his aura. As soon as he opened his mouth, even though he was wearing the lieutenant's military uniform that was obviously assigned to newcomers, he frightened these guys out of the way. When Leng Binyue and the others saw Zheng Mu appearing, their delicate and pretty faces obviously relaxed a lot. Even Luo Lan Lan, who was obviously ready to shake someone while holding the phone, stopped her movements. Mu Big Brother, you are finally here, it's these guys, they want to bully me. Zheng Mu. The originally cold face couldn't help but twitched a few times. Looking at Jiang Lan Lan who threw herself directly into his arms, Zheng Mu coughed lightly and lowered his voice. It's very good, don't pinch it next time, and talk well. Jiang Lanlin's sudden snarl made his skin crawl, it could be called a magical attack. Zheng Mu returned a reassuring look at Ling Bingyue, and briefly glanced at the people on his side. There were not many girls in their class, and they were basically all here. Zheng Mu looked at the man called Jiega in front of him. He had fiery red hair and was not wearing a lieutenant's uniform. Standing there gave off a rushing aura. You are the president of the Sea Dragon Guild. Your Sea Dragon Guild is the strongest guild in the lieutenant campus, do you dare to say it seriously and openly on the campus? Brother Jia frowned, who are you kid? Zheng Mu was not interested in talking nonsense with the other party, so he just stared at the other party quietly. Being watched by Zheng Mu's flat eyes, and after he appeared, the reactions of beauties like Ling Bingyue made Jiega snort coldly. Although I am not the president, the president is my brother, and I, Wang Jia, is the vice president. As for our Sea Dragon Guild, last year we were the first in the Guild League in the Weiguan campus. Hearing this, Zheng Mu nodded, 
as long as it is the rightful owner. Tomorrow, I will set up our guild in the lieutenant campus. One month later, I will submit a guild challenge to you. Do you dare to accept it? Zero seeking flowers. What? When Wang Jia heard Jing Mu's words, he suddenly wondered if there was something wrong with his ears. But those who reacted almost the same as him were some other members of the surrounding Sea Dragon Guild, as well as people watching from other guilds. Seeing that Jing Mu was not joking, Wang Jia was instantly amused by the brain circuit of this newcomer. Ha ha ha, do you know what you're talking about? Are you an S rank professional? The younger brother next to Wang Jia immediately interjected, Brother Jia, you are right about the situation of our military attache in southwest China. I know, which S-class will come to our place. Hearing this, Wang Jia looked at Zheng Mu even more disdainfully. Then the other party is at most an A-level professional, and he is still A-level, and his level must be much higher than the other party. He sneered, and he was no longer obstinate about these beauties. Boy, as your senior, I will give you a good lesson today. Of course, you want to bring up the point of guild warfare. Of course, there is no problem. Our Southwest Military Officer University. What the school focuses on is freedom with one fist. After finishing speaking, the younger brothers around laughed lowly. However, the challenge is not something you can challenge just by saying it is a challenge. Contribute points, understand. You don't have any contribution points as gambling capital, and you're going to gamble with our Sea Dragon Guild when you come up, do you think we have nothing to do every day? You. However, before Wang Jia finished speaking, a sudden shout came from the outside. Isn't it just contribution points? We're out. Everyone looked, but they didn't know when, a large group of newcomers dressed in lieutenant uniforms rushed here, their eyes swept over, at least there were more than a thousand people. The road directly downstairs of this dormitory is completely surrounded. But it was Sang Luo, Gu Ming and others who also rushed over after receiving news from other girls. Heng Shanha led the newcomers behind him who had been greatly favored by Zheng Mu, and rushed into the crowd, roaring and pushing the old fritters away one after another. These people have never seen such a reckless and united newcomer. One by one, when Wang Jie didn't speak, they didn't dare to do it directly. The scene instantly changed from the original Sea Dragon Guild siege and oppression of the newcomers to today's confrontation between the two armies. Boss, if you want to form a guild, all of us are willing to join. Heng Shanha shouted, and there was another response immediately behind him. These people know how terrifying Zheng Mu is. This means that the second round of assessment is currently going on at the top universities, and the news has not been released. Otherwise, give this. These old fried dough sticks are ten courageous, and they definitely dare not come to the door to provoke. And he fell in love with Zheng Mu's girlfriend right away. Zheng Mu nodded, and looked at Wang Jia who looked shocked and confused. We have two zero zero people here. According to the amount of five zero zero contribution points per person per month, that is to say, we can use one zero 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 contribution points as a bet. Can see Dragon Guild take it out. With the flat tone and the two thousand newcomers behind him who share the same hatred, even an old fritter like Wang Jia couldn't react for a while. The most important thing is that the opening is a gamble of ten million contribution points. It's fucking. When did it appear in a place like the lieutenant's campus? Even if it is a school official campus, that is unheard of. Zheng Mu frowned. Call your big brother, you can't make the decision. Hearing this, Wang Jia didn't dare to say anything at the time, and hurried to the side to report to his elder brother. The other side. Zheng Mu, are you really going to set up a guild? Leng Binyue said, but one hand was very naturally lightly wrapped around Zheng Mu's arm. Although he was talking to Zheng Mu, his eyes were clearly warning Jiang Lan Lan, who was holding Zheng Mu's other arm at the moment, but the latter couldn't help but didn't want to let go. Sneered. Launched an attack on A against Jing Mu. A series of envious eyes, either from veterans or newcomers, made Jing Mu a little at a loss as to what to do. But when he heard Lang Bingyue's question, he still nodded. That's right, when you go to the dormitory, you should have seen the environment here. It can even be described as a mixed bag. There are not a few scumbags. 
I am also worried about the bully. Ling happened to us, so we made this decision. Compared to one or two scattered and eaten by those guilds, it is better for us to unite and become the biggest, even the only bully guild. Hearing this, Leng Bingyue and the others were all speechless. On the contrary, professionals like Heng Shanha, who should have been eliminated in the first place, showed signs of emotion. With Sheng Mu's strength, do I need to worry about being bullied? Need to worry about being bullied? No need at all. So Zheng Mu did all this for the sake of people like them. Wu, boss, meeting you is the greatest luck in my life, Heng Shanha, you are really kind to us. Yeah, yeah, what the hell is the Sea Dragon Guild, dare to attack us and turn them into sea loaches? Chapter, 76 When Wang Jia left, he was confused and full of shock. When Wang Jia came back, he was excited and full of confidence. My elder brother said, our Sea Dragon Guild will take over your betting fight, and it will take five days. See you in five days at the largest arena in the Weiguan campus. After seeing Zheng Mu nodding, the members of Sea Dragon Guild finally left one after another. However, everyone can imagine that in the next month, these newcomers will definitely receive extra attention. On the first day of the newcomers' report, everyone united and there was a wave of two zero zero studs. This matter, not to mention the lieutenant campus, even if it spreads to the school officer campus, it will cause a heated discussion. However, to a certain extent, newcomers like Xing Mu will also be able to win a month of peace. Ha <laughs> ha you kid really won't settle down for a day. In Zheng Mu's dormitory, when Qin Ji heard about this incident, he immediately came to the door directly. General Qin, you have to say something with your conscience. Before I came here, I didn't know that you are here to train hooligans. Qin Ji smiled stiffly, this cannot be refuted. A little embarrassed coughed twice. Some things have happened recently, the military is a little short of manpower, so some people have been transferred from the campus. Zheng Mu curled his lips, thinking that this person has been transferred away for a long time. No matter how you say it is a campus here, no matter how much competition there is, it should be a healthy competition. However, let's take a look at the current situation of the lieutenant's campus. Zheng Mu can only speak two words. He he. If Zheng Mu and the others hadn't arrived in time today, depending on the posture of Wang Jia and his group, they could just pull people away by force. As for what will happen to those beautiful girls. Zheng Mu snorted coldly, it deserves it. Qin Ji was even more embarrassed, and naturally heard that Jing Mu was saying that Southwest Military Military University has changed to the current state, and it deserves it. However, Qin Ji became happy again afterward. Jing Mu knew the current situation and did not choose to leave it can only be said that the other party already had the idea of reorganizing the Weiguan campus of Southwest Military Military University. If outsiders know about this kind of thing, a freshman who has just entered the Southwest Military Military University will have to rectify the entire campus just the next day. I'm afraid I'll be taken as a lunatic. However, after Qin Ji has seen the magic of Zheng Mu, he has great confidence in him. Looking at Zheng Mu, he finally expressed his intention of coming. Principal Gu has already made a decision to reward you for winning the assessment. Speaking of taking out a bronzing card from his pocket, Zheng Mu looked at the appearance of the card. It's not a one-stop service card for a club, is it? The mysterious smile that Qin Ji had just propped up froze in place. Seeing the smile in Zheng Mu's eyes, he angrily threw something to him. Using this thing, you can make an exception and obtain three pieces of red brave level materials from the resource office. Principal Gu thinks that you are more interested in materials than equipment. The resources of Southwest Military Military University said that resources are the second in terms of quality, no first-class university dares to claim the first place. Speaking of Qin Ji, he walked directly outside, but just when he was about to reach the door, he seemed to think of something. Oh, by the way, that kid He Guang has now been transferred to the law enforcement department of the Weiguan campus. This is what Principal Gu meant. Looking at Qin Ji who closed the door and left. Then Zheng Mu looked at the gold card in his hand representing three pieces of red hero level materials, shaking his head speechless. I'm just a newcomer who came to school. The old people here should be regarded as soft persimmons, 
and the newcomer should be regarded as the leader. You school people are still in trouble now, so you have to use me to stand in the way. Zheng Mu was really tired. It's really hard work for those who can. A big figure like Gu Xingdong directly interfered with the personnel appointment of the next campus department, and even transferred He Guang, who admired Zheng Mu the most, to the law enforcement department. What exactly is this going to do? It goes without saying. However, the delivery of this gold card now reminded him of some things he had forgotten before. At the beginning, the spoils obtained from the Golden Worm Mother have not been studied carefully. Thinking of this, he hurriedly took his space backpack. The first is a gold skill book. Zheng Mu still vaguely remembered what the unique skill was. Conservation double, the only level of skill common to all occupations. It can actively double the value of a specified attribute of the body by reducing any attribute of the body in a short period of time. There is no cooldown time and no learning level limit. Fuck. Zheng Mu was stunned. He never imagined that he would keep such an awesome skill in his backpack and eat ashes for several days. I really wish I could give myself two big-eared melon seeds on the spot. After learning this skill, Zheng Gai couldn't wait to look at other things. I'm afraid that there will be another pearl that I will forget. Insect Mother's original sack, red hero-level material, which contains the original energy of the Golden Worm Mother's summoning and nurturing zerg, which can be used for equipment forging, potion making, etc. Emperor Vein Worm Egg, red hero-grade material, an egg laid by the Golden Worm Mother, has lost its vitality, and can be used for equipment forging, potion making, etc. Zheng Mu thought about the two materials and temporarily put them away. Then came a piece of equipment, which was also the only piece of equipment dropped from the Golden Worm Mother. The Curse of Disgust in the World, Growth Type, Red Brave Cloth Armor Top, originally the masterpiece of an outstanding spiritual weaver, after being infected by the power of an unknown curse, it became an evil treasure. The cooling time of a certain skill can be cancelled by sacrificing a certain amount of vitality. Note, the more you use this effect every day, the more health points you will absorb. Please use it with caution. Hiss. This, this is simply an artifact. When Zheng Mu saw the properties of this windbreaker, he was so excited that he almost laughed three times. One piece has no physical bonus at all, no attribute increase and no increase effect on skills. However, it was only an effect that temporarily lifted the cooldown of the skill, but it conquered Zheng Mu instantly. The most important thing is that this function consumes his own health points. When talking about health points with him, a mechanic, Zheng Mu said that he is really not sleepy. Adding up all the mechanical creations under his command now, even if the total blood volume is not 100, 0, 0, it will not be much different. Equip the clothes on your equipment bar, saying that you have been wearing it for so long, except for the two guns Holy Land Demon Wolf, that can't keep up with it, there is only one blood phoenix seal, left. Compared with other professionals, it is definitely not just as simple as being shabby. However, when this curse of the world's rejection, appeared, it immediately let Zheng Mu know the direction of his future equipment needs. Except for some equipment like Blood Phoenix Seal, which has a heaven-defying effect, it is aimed at shortening the cooling time of skills. Looking in the mirror, wearing this somewhat old-fashioned dark red windbreaker, to be honest, it really smells like a lone wolf in the doomsday. TSK TSK TSK, Sister Bingyue, you're going to be in big trouble now. Looking at himself in the mirror, Zheng Mu muttered narcissistically for a while, and then turned his gaze to something else. Now Yuan Pill, red hero level consumable, after use, it can completely heal the fundamental soul damage caused by spiritual attacks, and integrate the user's mental power to improve its mental power to a certain extent. Conditions of use, none. Well, this thing is really unusable for the time being, even if it is thrown on Zheng Mu himself. Or never use it. Whether it is a spiritual attack or physical damage. The final effect is all about the health bar. Zheng Mu said that whether you stab me with a long knife or saw me with a saw, it doesn't matter to me. When Zheng Mu looked at the last thing, he was silent. Unknown human corpse. Is this still unknown? Could it be Wang Long's unlucky S-rank beast master? In the bathroom, looking at Wang Long, 
who was dying with his eyes full of sharp knives all over his body, Jing Mu still remembers the incomparable appearance of the other party before the original assessment. TSK TSK TSK, didn't you promise to teach us a lesson in the desert? You don't have any credit at all. Jing Mu shook his head with a sneer, and waved his hand casually. The next moment, Feng Yin was the official minister who appeared in Hudi. Accompanied by the sound of flesh and blood being squeezed, Wang Long's corpse turned into an indistinguishable mummy in just a short while. Putting the corpse into the storage backpack for the time being, Jing Mu's eyes quickly looked at the scarlet skill book that appeared in his hand. Imitation Beast, Beast Master LV1 skill, which can fuse and absorb the body of the target monster to the extent that it can be freely transformed into the target and has certain skill attributes of the target. Learning Conditions, Beast Master Profession can learn to work. Zheng Mu's eyes lit up. Although it is only a level 1 skill, this skill is definitely one of the core skills of the S-level profession of Beast Master. It is not an exaggeration to say that I have produced this skill book by myself, which is the most valuable thing in Wang Long. Looking at the skill book in his hand, the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet suddenly squirmed, and the next moment, the liquor black claw, who had received modular seal cutting, before, appeared immediately. This time I'll give you this skill too. You have the skill of the dark crypt, so it's very easy to act. Muttering, as the sound of crackling electric arc spread throughout Haika's body, under Zheng Mu's intense gaze, Haika's body began to squirm like fluid in the arc. On the panel, the words imitation beast skill appeared impressively. Seeing Black Claw constantly switching back and forth between Black's liquid body and its metal body, Jing Mu's gaze suddenly froze. Name, Liquor Black Claw. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Jing Mu. Level, Purple Rare. Durability, 400400. Defense Power, 2400. Skill 1. Hidden breath attack, moves secretly and quickly, and is more terrifying and threatening in the dark night, no cooldown time. Skill 2, tearing, using sharp claws and a long tongue to attack, the damage is huge, there is a chance that the target will enter a state of blood loss, no cooldown time. Skill 3, very poisonous, the metal that makes the liquor contains highly poisonous, and a direct hit will make the target enter a poison state. Skill 4, scavenger, which can carry out internal circulation by devouring flesh and blood, and repair the damaged body. Skill 5, Beast Instinct, Liquor will have super battlefield learning ability and adaptability, can cope with various intensities of battles, and make the most reasonable judgments. Skill 6, Dark Crypt, Summon a Dark Crypt, Enter it, you can approach the target silently from the ground in the dark night, launch a sudden blow, no cooldown time. Skill 7, Imitation Beast, which can fuse and absorb the body of the target monster, to the extent that it can be freely transformed into the target, and has a certain skill attribute of the target. Cooling time, 24 hours. Note, after successfully completing the imitation beast skill on a certain target, it can be transformed directly without cooling down in the future. I carved a new skill for Black Claw, which directly caused the opponent to level up. From the original Blue Elite class to the Purple Rare class, it has become an existence at the same level as Optimus Prime. However, if you only talk about the risk factor, the risk factor of Black Claw is definitely higher than that of Tianzhu. After all, the liquor itself is a combination of a warrior and an assassin, and Black Claw, who has been blessed with two seal cutting skills, is bound to be even more terrifying. Then the next step is to complete the guild's affairs early, and then go to the resource library to select materials. I hope there are enough materials to transform Miss Mirage there. Zheng Mu murmured, as long as he can create Raj, a mechanical creature of the Red Bravery class in the future, within this period of time. Getting a super while BBW aside. Red hero level mechanical creations, clean up these rotten fish and rotten shrimps in the lieutenant's campus. Pretty easy, at least according to Zheng Mu. In the guild management department of Weiguan campus, Zheng Mu and his newcomers who want to set up a guild are obviously known to the people here. Student, the establishment of a guild is not a trivial matter, are you sure you don't think about it anymore? The young lady in charge of the guild's information level looked serious. However, seeing that Zheng Mu and the others had already made a decision, 
they stopped talking and pushed things like the form in front of him. Union name, logo. Zheng Mu glanced at the people around him, who stared at him with small eyes. Well, that's what it means to let him decide. Suddenly, an idea appeared in my mind, and the shoulders in my hands slid quickly. In just a short while, a peculiar hourglass pattern with a huge gear in the middle appeared on the paper. In the column of the guild name, there is also an extra line of words. Leng Bingyue murmured, the wheel of truth. Zheng Mu nodded with a smile, but without anyone noticing, he gently brushed the windbreaker on his body. The hourglass represents time, that is, the cool-down time of the skills that limit his strength now. Needless to say, the gear is his identity as a mechanic. When one day both are under his complete control, in Zheng Mu's view, he will be the one standing on the throne of the void. That is, truth. Everyone doesn't care much about the name of the guild, after all, the main body of the guild will definitely be Zheng Mu, who is the highest combat power in the future. So what he said, that is naturally what? The Weiguan campus, the top floor of a ten-story building. When the news of Zheng Mu's establishment of the guild reached here, Wang Jia immediately found his eldest brother excitedly. Brother, really? Those newcomers actually set up a guild called Wheel of Truth, ha ha ha, tens of millions of contribution points. However, Wang Hai, the president of the Sea Dragon Guild, who looked at his excited younger brother, wearing gold-rimmed glasses and looking like a gentle scum, frowned. Don't be careless, have you found out the information I asked you to check? Hearing this, the smile on Wang Jie's face became more and more intense, and he pushed the information he had investigated to his elder brother with a smile. Brother, I personally found several sources to confirm the above things, and I can't be wrong. Ha ha ha, the guy in the lead is actually a mechanic, just that A-level special professional mechanic. As he spoke, Wang Jia leaned forward and back together laughing. After seeing the above information about Qing Mu, Wang Hai was also taken aback. Although the above information is incomplete, there are no details about Jing Mu's strength introduction and assessment. However, the words class A mechanic were clearly written on it. Now, even Wang Hai instantly relaxed his vigilance in his heart. It seems that he is really a stunned young man. It is not enough that the kid can make those more than 2,000 newbies obey him with a weak job like a mechanic. It must be because of his unusual personal background. Wang Hai's eyes flickered and he beckoned. Get ready, one month later, absorb the Wheel of Truth Guild. On the other side, Zheng Mu came to the resource center with the reward gold card on his body. Chapter, 77 Southwest Military Military University, Resource Office of Weiguan Campus There are many old buildings around, but when Zheng Mu came to the resource office, he was surprised to find that it was much smaller than he imagined. It's almost the same as the education department's yamen in a small place like Yuntong City. However, when he just stepped into the gate, there was a sudden blur in front of his eyes. There is already another world in front of me. Fuck, this is actually a house with a special space. Zheng Mu was surprised. To be honest, before this, he really thought that only he had the space expansion function inside his base vehicle. When he secretly thought that he was indeed a frog in a well, Zheng Mu's eyes began to look around. There are quite a lot of counters for dealing with things inside, just like the interior of some large airports in the previous life, there are many senior students from the Southwest Military Military University, who are here to deliver some tasks and receive resources. When he found a counter where no one was in line, Mu directly took out the gold card that Qin Ji gave him. I'm here to claim my reward. The staff member was startled when he saw the card in Zheng Mu's hand, and his pupils shrank even more when he saw Zheng Mu's young face. However, he responded quickly and took the card. Please wait. Your privilege card shows that you can choose three red hero level materials in the resource library. Do you want to receive them all at this time? This person's attitude was obviously a lot more respectful, as if he was afraid of offending Zheng Mu. After Zheng Mu nodded, not long after, an imposing officer in the uniform of the resource office walked over. Hello, please show your ID. After checking that the documents were correct, Zheng Mu came to a teleportation formation under the leadership of the other party. There is actually a teleportation array inside. 
The officer nodded, as if considering Zheng Mu's identity, and patiently explained something. The treasure curry of the resource center stores too many priceless treasures, and the treasure house itself is not here, but stored in a special space that no one knows about. You need to use a special teleportation array to enter. After the officer did some operations that Zheng Mu couldn't understand, the teleportation array was activated. The next moment, Zheng Mu felt that his feet were empty, and he was directly in a strange space. Brilliant beams of light are floating around in this pitch black space. The figure of the officer had disappeared. However, the sound came to Zheng Mu's ears. Through your thoughts, you come up with the general information about the items you want, and the treasure house will automatically screen them for you. As soon as Zheng Mu's eyes lit up, this function is amazing. 643 hesitated for a moment. Right now, he definitely needs to select as much as possible the most difficult part of the materials needed to make Mirage. Follow Zheng Mu's thoughts. In the next moment, hundreds of streamers of different colors came towards this side. After flying around Zheng Mu for a circle, they left one after another, leaving only three scarlet light groups in place, surrounding Zheng Mu. Sura Blood Soul, Red Hero Level Material, the soul of the blood break Shura in the secret realm of different time and space. It is extremely polluting, but it can be used to forge weapons, which will greatly improve the attack properties of weapons. Ice Spirit Origin, Red Hero Level Material, the precious origin of the ice spirit in different time and space secret realms its sleeping soul is frozen inside. It can be used for equipment forging and potion manufacturing, and can also be used for contracts for summoning professions. Heart of Anger Demon, Red Hero Level Material, the heart of the mutant anger demon of the demon race in the secret realm of different time and space. As long as the legendary anger demon remains angry, it will have inexhaustible energy, but all this is just legendary, of which contains an extremely unstable source of energy, which can be used for equipment forging and medicine machine manufacturing. Fuck. This is simply tailor-made. Just once, Zheng Mu was completely fascinated by the magic of this treasure house. I just thought about the general information, but the other party was able to select the most suitable item from a large number of results. TSK TSK TSK, no wonder those guys have all kinds of scheming methods just to contribute points, and these contribution points seem to be really good things. Zheng Mu thought to himself, and chose these three things directly without any hesitation. The next second, when he came back to his senses, he was shocked to find that he was already in a small antique room, and on the table in front of him were the three items he had chosen. The officer who disappeared before also sat in front of him with a smile. Hello, please sign here, after the registration is completed, you can take these things away. Zheng Mu finished the process in a daze, but suddenly stopped the officer who was about to leave. Senior, that, I don't know what I need to do if I still want to get the things in the treasure house just now. Hearing this, the man seemed not surprised that Zheng Mu would ask such a question. Except for completing special tasks, or making outstanding contributions to the school, as specially approved by the above, the lieutenant campus does not have the right to touch the Red Brave Level Treasure House. You need to upgrade to the Colonel Campus, where you can use a lot of contribution points, redeem what you need. When Zheng Mu left the resource with a little disappointment. Aj, in an antique tea room, the officer who had received Zheng Mu before put a piece of information on the table and left respectfully. Hey, this kid's goal is very clear. After entering, he immediately thought of what he wanted. It seems that he has some new ideas. The old man glanced at the message above and chuckled lightly. And sitting opposite him was Gu Xingdong, the vice president of Southwest Military Military University. When the latter heard the old man's words, he shook his head with a wry smile. Principal, do you really think highly of him? The previous Red Brave class base car was enough to shock the world. What's more, is it really a sow giving birth? Ha 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 the old man laughed, but he didn't argue for Zheng Mu. I don't know if it can be made, but I'm afraid this kid is no less tossed about than Xiaoji, and if you entrust that matter to him, I'm afraid you will have some worries. Walking on the way back to the dormitory, Zheng Mu frowned and thought. A total of five materials are required to manufacture magic battle puppet robot Mirage. Among them, Satan's Soul Mana Armor Library, 
Magical Intelligence Corps Milaj Strauss, and Magic Firepower grabbed three main materials that were taken out before using them. There should be no problem in converting them. I have a lot of bionic human muscle tissue in my hand, and I need to use this thing when making Tifa and the others. He also has a lot in stock. But. The nanoarray skin defense system is used to invisibly improve the body's external defense ability after receiving an attack. What exactly is needed to transform it into it? Suddenly, Zheng Mu stopped. With a snap, I gave myself a big-eared melon seed. Under the surprised gazes of the passers-by, he gritted his teeth with remorse on his face. What Irma is really stupid. Just think about the details of this material in the treasure house just now, even if you can't take it away, at least you know what is the most suitable thing. Hey! Stupid stupid! Zheng Mu was really speechless. After entering the treasure house, he was so shocked by the awesome function that he forgot about it. How can such a good material encyclopedia not be used? And just when Zheng Mu was frantic, Ri Shi suddenly came from behind him. What? Finally, I couldn't bear the condemnation of my conscience and began to collapse myself. Zheng Mu frowned and turned around, the frown deepened immediately. He Shang Yun. At this moment, He Shang Yun is dressed in a lieutenant's uniform, and with her bumpy figure, she is full of heroism. She is completely different from her original image in the Tunggu Desert, but each has its own merits. Seeing that Zheng Mu didn't feel ashamed at all when facing him, on the contrary, he was more calm than himself. He Shang Yun was shocked by the other party's shamelessness. Don't you have anything you want to tell me? Zheng Mu frowned slightly, already understanding what the other party meant. I just feel a slight toothache. Hiss, girl, so you gave up Hanlong University and chose to come to the Southwest Military Officer in order to ask for an apology from me. Before I answer your question, I have a question I want to ask you. Are you hating me because of love? Or can't stop? Immediately, He Shang Yun was so angry that her brows stood on end. She, who had received a good education since childhood, opened her mouth. In the end, I could only squeeze out a sentence, shameless. Zheng Mu shrugged. I just made a mistake that all men make. Looking at He Shang Yun who was stunned and never thought that he would be able to say such shameless words, Zheng Mu secretly smiled. Spread your hands. Besides, aside from the facts, don't you, He Guyun, have nothing wrong with you? He Shan Yun was stunned, what did you say? I was wrong. What's wrong with me? It's obvious that you are shameless and did such a thing to me. Passersby, 27. What kind of roadside melon is this? Sensing the surprised and strange gazes of the people around him, He Shan Yun was visibly flustered, but Cheng Mu smiled slightly. Did I do that to everyone? Why just you? Of course it's because you are so beautiful, as the saying goes, beauty is also original sin, that's the truth. A round of shadowless fist directly beat He Shang Yun to the point where he was completely defeated. Seeing that the other party was flustered, Zheng Mu rolled his eyes and suddenly let out a long sigh. But forget it, now that the two of us are real classmates in the same class, and even partners in the same guild, let us forget about the unpleasantness of the past and think about a brighter future together, how about it? Let's forgive each other for our mistakes. He Shang Yun. How could He Shang Yun who had received such a heavy blow, when he came back to his senses, Zheng Mu had already run a lot of distance. Asshole. Zheng Mu ran fast all the way, but returned to the resource office again. The slap he gave just now put his brain back into normal operation. Although Ling Binyue and the others can only choose purple rare grade materials, they are not completely helpless on their side. Hello, can I exchange red hero level items for materials of the same level? It was the same counter as before, and the other party was obviously taken aback when they heard Jing Mu's question. But then immediately nodded. There is no problem with this, but we need to identify and value the items you provided. Regarding this, Zheng Mu directly took out the things on himself that were really useless at the moment. Now Yuan Pill, Red Hero Level Consumable. After use, it can completely heal the fundamental soul damage caused by spiritual attacks, and integrate the user's mental power to improve its mental power. Conditions of use, none. 
After seeing that it was indeed a red brave level thing, the staff immediately contacted specialized personnel to come and identify it. But at this time, He Shang Yun did not know when, but followed Zheng Mu into the resource office. While Zheng Mu was quietly waiting for someone to come, he suddenly felt someone pulling him from behind. Damn, Miss Hada, you have to take a look at it with your hands, uh, what's wrong with you? As soon as he turned around and saw He Shang Yun, Zheng Mu was shocked, but when he was about to say something, he saw that the latter was looking at him with teary eyes. Looking back, when he saw the staff member's strange gaze, he suddenly felt bad. Although I'm a scumbag, I really won't admit to things I haven't done. At this time, He Shang Yun pointed to the Now Yuan pill placed on the counter. Then, is that thing yours? Zheng Mu nodded, and then looked at He Shang Yun who was obviously full of longing in front of him, and could even be described by Yuan Chiu. Asked speechlessly. Don't tell me that some of your relatives urgently need this thing, it's too bloody. Even if you want to develop a relationship with me, at least find a novel excuse. However, Yin Shang Yun grabbed Mu's arm. I, I really need this thing, that, are you going to sell it? Can you sell it to me? Seeing that the other party was serious, Zheng Mu glanced at the staff apologetically, and put away the things for the time being. Pulling the teary-eyed He Shang Yun, he quickly walked out of the resource office. Tell me, what exactly is going on? I won't go into details about the plot of Goshue. It is roughly that when He Shang Yun's father went out to perform a mission again, he unfortunately encountered two monsters with strong mental attacks. Although he was lucky enough to kill him, he was still attacked by the mental power of the opponent before he died, and his soul was damaged. It's not that our He family hasn't looked for all the things that repair the soul, but due to the low level, none of them have any real effect, only the brain essence pill. Listening to He Shang Yun's narration, especially for such a big beauty who was taken advantage of by him, begging himself with tears in his eyes, even Zheng Mu couldn't help but sigh at this moment. Forget it, it's a big deal, I'll use the contribution point to exchange for a similar purple rare material, it shouldn't be much different. As he spoke, he shook his head and directly stuffed the Now Yuan pill into the opponent's hand. Get up and walk towards the resource office again. You don't need to thank you, but let's make it clear first, you are not allowed to mention that matter in the future, you. When Zheng Mu turned his head again, he only had time to see a figure who was leaving quickly. Zheng Mu suddenly had a black question mark face. Is it so decisive? You really don't even say a word of thanks. As he spoke, he looked at his right hand that had fought with the opponent before, and sighed. Hey, what a loss. Leaving aside He Shan Yun's affairs, after spending 120,00 contribution points to select a purple rare material from the resource center called Blue Sea Cloud Jellyfish Canopy. Zheng Mu immediately returned to his residence. Rubbing his hands in prayer, he directly cast Turning Golden Hand on it, and the next moment, the material in front of him twisted for a while. A thin thing that looked like some kind of fabric appeared neatly in front of him. Nano Array Skin Defense System. Damn it, it's done. Zheng Mu suddenly roared excitedly. The next moment, he couldn't wait to take out the other three exchanged materials one by one. Driving the special skill of the windbreaker on his body, the next moment, some traces of reduction appeared on the panel recording the blood volume of each mechanical creation. After consuming a total of 300 points of durability of mechanical creations, Zheng Mu Golden Hand originally had a one day cooldown time. Whether he can produce the mirage he has been thinking about today has directly changed from a doubt to an affirmation. Looking at three things neatly arranged in front of him, Heart of Angry Demon, Origin of Ice Spirit, and Sura Blood Soul, Zheng Mu rubbed his hands excitedly. Ha ha ha, I am the future president secretary of the Wheel of Truth Guild, Mirajan he he he. Chapter, 78 no wonder Zheng Mu would not be as excited as he is now when facing beauties like Ling Binyue and Jiang Lanlan. In fact, what I am doing right now is what all the second dimension dreams of. The other two-dimensional ones can only play with figures at most, and look at those two-dimensional girls who are beautiful but are just decorations after all. However, it is actually being manufactured. The completed mirage not only has feelings, but also wisdom, and there is no problem even with some indescribable things. Red's hero-level humanoid mechanical creation, 
I don't know how far it can go. With that said, he finally stopped hesitating. After preparing all the transformed mechanical components, move with your thoughts. The next moment, a constantly stirring light group full of danger appeared in front of Xingmu, including all the mechanical components in it. Ended with a burst of dazzling light effects dash. In the mid-air of Zheng Mu's dormitory, a silver-haired beauty with an angelic face slowly landed on the ground with her eyes closed. Zheng Mu, who was caught off guard by the scene that should have been marked with holy light, only felt his blood pressure rise in an instant, and there was an obvious burning sensation in his nostrils. However, it's hard to die, the hesitating dormitory is too small, and Zheng Mu didn't release Tifa to clean up the room during this time. As soon as Milaj appeared, a delicate jade foot was suddenly stepped on the air. Oh! Accompanied by a coquettish cry, the holy light in front of Zheng Mu's eyes began to amplify until he was caught off guard and was directly magnified by his face. The magic attack was accompanied by varying amounts of physical damage. In an instant, Zheng Mu collapsed directly on the bed behind him. Extremely sorry, Master Master, are you okay, I... As soon as Milaj opened his eyes, he saw Zheng Mu, whose eyes had lost focus, as if his soul had come out of his body, and cried out anxiously. However, he immediately discovered his embarrassing predicament. Immediately, an angelic face that could not see any flaws, quickly flushed, grabbed the quilt at the side, and wrapped it around himself. Really, dominating the behavior of adults is not what a gentleman should have. Hearing Milaj's soft and waxy voice, the other party's shy and angry voice was obviously throbbing. Zheng Mu, who had just experienced a super double, finally came to his senses. Looking at Mirage who was shy at the moment and didn't dare to look at him. Zheng Mu immediately discovered the difference in the other party. As a panel unfolded, Milaj's information appeared directly in front of him. Name, Mana Battle Puppet Robot Mirage. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level, Red Brave Class. Durability, 15W15W. Defense Power, 5700. Skill 1, Full Body Reception Soul of Satan, the whole body turns into a Satan posture, has extremely high magic and physical attack power, and will temporarily unlock the access to Satan's magic skills, which requires a lot of energy, cooling time, hourly worker. Skill 2, Full Body Reception Devil Shout Lay, the whole body turns into a demon shout lay posture, with extremely high magic and physical attacks, it will greatly increase the resistance to physical and magic damage, it needs to be consumed a lot of magic power, cooling time, 12 hours. Skill 3, Full Body Reception Demon God Halfaz, the whole body turns into the Devil God Halfaz posture, has extremely high magic and physical attack power, and will temporarily unlock the permission to use Satan's magic skills, which requires a lot of consumption magic power, cooling time, one day. Skill 4, Devil's Heart, an extremely unstable magic power supply system, which makes the instantaneous magic power generated by Mirage's body unstable when he transforms, and cannot maintain the state of receiving the whole body for a long time. The number of times that can be activated per day, B31. Skill 5, Dress up magic cloakroom, Mirage can instantly change clothes at any time, no cooldown time. Skill 6, which, Milaj has a very strong growth potential. When killing a demon monster with a high value, it can receive the opponent's body and master the new reception magic. Cooling period, January. I rely on. Looking at the crazy attribute, Zheng Mu spat out two words in a daze. Powerful. Too strong. Who would have imagined that this delicate beauty who wrapped herself in a quilt and shyly and angrily dared not look at Jing Mu's fiery eyes had a durability that could be called a monster. You know, Jing Mu's Transformers base, which passed the IV-63 Golden Worm Mother, has a durability of only 2 W. Comparing the two with each other, Mirage not only has several times higher durability, but also deceived too much in the upper limit of attack power. Thinking of Mirage's strongest attack, it can surpass the terrifying necrosis laser cannon at the beginning. Zheng Mu was so excited that he couldn't help himself. However, later, when he saw the opponent's skill introduction. But it was completely stunned. Fuck, this restriction is too stupid. Whether it is the three receiving magics that I am familiar with, 
or the follow-up which, skills that can improve strength, they are definitely very powerful. However, the opponent has a core with unstable magic power. The instantaneously generated mana value is unstable. What does it mean? Zheng Mu's face turned blue and then red, and he didn't notice it at all. At this moment, Milaj was looking cute and puzzled, reaching out and shaking his hand in front of him. The instantaneous magic power is uncertain, that is to say, sometimes a large amount of magic power may be generated instantly, which can support Mirage's battle for a long time. Sometimes the magic power may even only be able to support her to accept a certain state for a few seconds. Master Master, what are you thinking? What's wrong? It's broken, Master Juggernaut is actually broken it's terrible. Mirage's voice full of panic and self-doubt came, pulling Zheng Mu's thoughts back, seeing the other party's guilt, wishing to understand his stupid appearance halfway. The originally depressed mood, which was more or less depressed, also recovered instantly. Unstable is unstable, even if Mirage is only a real woman for a second in the future, your terrifying to explosive attack power is not something that ordinary opponents can resist. Thinking of this, Zheng Zhuo pressed his hand on the top of the opponent's head. The feeling is very real, even if the other party is not made by himself, even he can't judge the other party's true identity. Okay, Mirage, I'm fine, let me get you some clothes first. Zheng Mu originally planned to say something, but when he saw the canyon gully shining with holy light, it instantly became red. Ignoring other things, I hurriedly took out the clothes I bought during the previous big purchase from the storage backpack. Fortunately, I bought a lot of various models at that time. There is no need to worry about the scene that Zheng Mu still remembers when Tifa was created. Knock knock. Just when Zheng Mu was watching Mirage, transformed into a model, using cross-dressing magic to change his image one after another. There was a sudden knock on the door. As soon as he opened the door, Zheng Mu was taken aback when he saw the figure standing at the door. Bing Yue. How did you get in here? This is the boy's dormitory. Leng Bingyue held two silver and white cards in his hands, and there was an obvious smile on his face. However, this smile froze instantly when she saw Mirage standing behind Zheng Mu when he opened the door. Look at the women's clothes that were thrown everywhere because of the wrong size after Mirage picked them up. Leng Bingyue's smile finally disappeared slowly. Master President, is there any guest here? Milaj asked softly, that elegant tone made Leng Bingyue's complexion even uglier. In front of this opponent, Jiang Lanlan seemed to stand aside. Do you really need that kind of thing? Zheng Mu looked at Leng Bingyue with a complicated expression, and opened his mouth. How should he answer this question? Looking back at the messy scene, he was faced with such a problem that was directly related to his own ability. Shaking his head is a problem with his body, nodding his head is a problem with his character. All right. Zheng Mu nodded decisively. You're young, you understand each other. The corner of Leng Bingyue's mouth twitched. Zheng Mu's shamelessness has also been taught since she was a child, but it seems that after the other party's awakening, a certain aspect of her nature seems to have completely let herself go. Take a deep breath and let yourself not do anything irrational here. Passed over the silver card in his hand. This is the assessment reward given to me and Kai Shinkuen by the school. He, Sang Luo and the others received a mission to go out and kill monsters. I will also pass his to you. He couldn't help but stuff things into Zheng Mu's hands. He left without looking back. Master President, is that lady your girlfriend? She is so beautiful. Miraja's voice came through, innocent, lovely, elegant, and rich in every way. This is Zheng Mu's Mirage. Leng Bingyue is indeed beautiful, but I'm sorry, these are Mirage. In a dark and damp mountain forest. Zheng Mu walked through the mountains with a vigilant face, checking the map in his hand from time to time. On his wrist, a small panoramic sand table projection is in operation. According to calculations, the location of the secret map in your hand should be nearby. The voice of the Red Queen came from the watch, and Zheng Mudong expanded the search range even if the surrounding T-800s and liquors were around. It was already the third day after he created Mirage. In order to test Mirage's specific combat power, 
Zheng Mu thought of the secret map that he got from the president of the Black Wind Union when he was in Yuntong City. After learning that Ling Bingyue and the others had all accepted the mission and wanted to familiarize themselves with the mission system of the campus, Zheng Mu could only come here by himself in the teleportation array. It took most of the day to grope and search, with the help of the vision of hundreds of patrol eagles. They finally determined the approximate location of the map target. Soon, after receiving a T-800 message Zheng Mu quickly took Mirage and rushed there. Zero seeking flowers zero. What came into view was a gloomy cave, and from time to time one could hear ghostly horns and wind-like caves. Very scary. Hearing Mirage's trembling voice behind him, Zheng Mu turned his head and looked at the other party speechlessly. It really deserves to be a red hero level mechanical creation. It seems that at this level of humanoid mechanical creation, its own character and ability have completely approached real people. At this moment, Milaj has most of the. Most girls are afraid of this kind of gloomy environment. Master President, do we really want to go in? Milaj was a little hesitant. If it was a normal fight against monsters, she would not have the slightest worry at all if she was asked to fight in an open environment. But when I think about it, if I go in for a while, I may encounter very scary grimaces, scary furry bugs, and things like mice. Mirage exudes strong resistance all over his body. However, Cheng Mu, who had already experienced a secret realm, smiled lightly. This is a secret realm. Don't look at the entrance like this, but the interior is actually another space. Milaj followed behind Zheng Mu suspiciously, and approached the hole. This time, Zheng Mu didn't rush in rashly. The next moment, the information of the secret realm appeared in front of him. Difficult level secret realm Aspia cult stronghold. Maximum number of participants, 4. Entry conditions, no more than 430. Conditions for customs clearance. Kill all monsters in the secret realm. Introduction The Aspia cult is a large scale cult that has been passed down for a long time. It has been engaged in monster experiments and body transformation for a long time. The world's evil god Aspia. Seeing that the information of the secret realm can still be displayed, Zheng Mu couldn't help but breathe a sigh of relief. For nearly two months, this secret realm has not been discovered, nor has it disappeared or moved randomly. In a sense, his luck is quite good. As Zheng Mu took a step forward, the next moment his body was together with all the surrounding mechanical creations. Disappeared in front of the cave. Just like what Zheng Mu said. With the recovery of sight, although everyone is indeed in a place that is obviously in a cave. But there is no dark and closed situation at the entrance before. On the contrary, if you look around, the space in front of you is very huge. If you pass through a tunnel, you will immediately see a huge space. It was as if a mountain had been completely hollowed out from the inside. Figures with strange graffiti masks were either patrolling or surrounding a huge high platform, preparing for something. Zheng Mu's eyes narrowed slightly. Name, Aspia Outer Cultist. Race, Mutant Human. Level, 425, LV30. Skills, Firepower Suppression LV1. Partial Transformation LV1, Beast Burst LV1. Zheng Mu frowned slightly. Sure enough, it was like Princess Ruby's secret realm back then. Although the recommended level is LV30, the level of monsters inside it will not stop at LV30. Zheng Mu waved his hand slightly, and the next moment, patrol eagles flew to the top of this secret realm without making any sound. Seeing these wandering figures clearly magnified in the picture, Zheng Mu frowned slightly. Really? There are traces of transformation. In the screen, even among the peripheral cultists whose information he scanned just now, under the torn clothes, many inhuman features can still be seen. Or the hands are shaped like animal claws, or the skin has scales, or some simply pull a long tail straight. Suddenly, while Zheng Mu was still collecting as much information as possible about the monsters here, the seven figures who were busy on the high platform seemed to sense something. Chi Shu Shu suddenly looked towards him. There are intruders. Hearing the sharp siren and the surrounding cultists swarming towards him, Zheng Mu's complexion changed slightly, but he suddenly ordered. Attack! 
The next moment, when the patrol eagle was deployed, the T-800s that started to scatter around were rushing out from behind the rock bunkers one by one. Bang bang bang. Da da da. The shotgun of the T-800 collided with the firepower in the hands of the cultists here, and in an instant, the entire secret realm was extremely lively. The intensive firepower is fighting together, and the two sides are not much different in various attributes. To Zheng Mu's slight surprise, after his T-800 was attacked, apart from some sparks shooting out from his body, the attack was not affected at all. The same is true of the cultists on the opposite side. Looking at the black matter surging up from each other's body after being attacked every time, Zheng Mu seemed to have thought of something, and immediately looked in the direction of the high platform in the distance. However, when he saw the attributes of those figures, his pupils shrank slightly. He actually completely underestimated the so-called Aspia cult talent. Chapter, 79 Name, Official Cultist of Aspia Race, Mutant Human Level, 430, LV35 Skills, Evil Ghost Curse LV2, Partial Transformation LV1, Beast Outbreak LV2, Rapid Regeneration IV1, Sacrifice Max When Ulysses looked towards them, these seven people had already torn off their robes. The next moment, a body full of hideous sutures appeared in front of Zheng Mu in horror. The brilliance of Aspia will fill the earth, and the grace of death will broadcast to the world. Give your flesh and blood. The hoarse voice matched the crazy tone. Zheng Mu didn't say anything yet, but suddenly felt a chill coming from behind. Wow! A formal cultist unexpectedly appeared behind him without making a sound, as if teleporting. A heart like a wolf's claw, straight to the back of the heart. You will be part of greatness. A clear sense of touch was acting on Zheng Mu's back, and the huge force caught him off guard, or in other words, he didn't even think about defending, and flew straight forward. Fuck. Fuck it. Looking at his sharp claws, there was no blood dripping as expected, and the cultist, who was still joyful in victory a moment ago, was stunned. Fuck, this script is wrong. However, he hadn't waited for him to figure out what the reason was. Beside him, an evil person like him would cry out in horror as an evil wave of magic power erupted from his side in an instant. How dare you do anything to the president? Receive the soul of Satan with your whole body. A cultist from outside screamed, his body twisted suddenly, and in the next second he turned into a werewolf, madly heading towards Xing Mu. Feeling that the sight in front of him was blocked, Zheng Mu, who was originally excited, turned cold instantly. Almost without thinking, there was a sudden stab at the foot. The only level skill conservation double, that was obtained not long ago in 2020 was cast instantly. Next moment. The agility of more than 100 points was directly reduced to zero by Zheng Mu. The surging power is like a volcano accumulating in the muscles. Seeing that the werewolf who is about to give his handsome face a deep kiss with his bloody mouth has come to him. There was a sneer on the corner of Zheng Mu's mouth. The shadow under his feet surged suddenly, and the next second, the black claws of the liquor rushed out. Pfft. The sharp claws pierced the werewolf's body, and the huge inertia was instantly stopped by the opponent, looking at the ferocious wolf head that had almost been handed to him. Zheng Mu's long-prepared punch suddenly swung out. Yeah shit thunder. Accompanied by the sound of a cracking skull, there seemed to be something sticky in his hand. In the next moment, the ladder flew upside down in the air. While his body was still in midair, a message had already flashed across Jing Mu's panel. You killed the cultists outside Aspia for 28, you got 288 experience points, the blue elite grade material polluted special steel. Zheng Mu looked at the body of the cultist who flew upside down and smashed into a piece of cargo, curled his lips in disdain and cursed in a low voice. I'm a mechanic, do you think I'm using the crispy method? After shaking off the red and white things in his hands, the state of conservation double, quickly recovered. But just for this short moment, another message flashed across Zheng Mu's panel. You killed the official cult member of Aspia for 35, and got 1621 experience points, the purple rare material shards of Aspia gem. In the line of sight, Miss Milaj, who was originally wearing a ball head and elegant figure, has disappeared. Instead, there was a wild woman with snow-white skin, 
a long black tail behind her, and a sexy woman with devil wings on her back. This kind of trash, dare to grow up with the people. Seeing that he had just released a dark rage, and was instantly blown into powder, Milaj in the form of Satan immediately gave a cold snort of disdain. However, Zheng Mu was already in a cold sweat after seeing the other party's message. Go and clean up the others. Your time is running out. That's right. The truth is that ridiculous. In the last second, Zheng Mu was still shocked by Milaj's strength, and in the next second, he saw the opponent's information panel. After the bright words magical battle puppet robot Mirage 52 seconds left in satanic form, Jing Mu was directly surprised by the opponent's magic power reserve. It's already this time, sister, do you still have time to say something cruel? Hearing Jing Mu's words, Mirage in satanic form froze for a moment, blushed slightly, and finally dodged in an instant, rushing towards the central high platform. The body is still in mid-air, and on the fingers of both hands, the magic power of dark purple is entangled, turning into a tornado. In an instant, people smashed down the figures below. Super Sadistic Fury Seeing the shocking attack above their heads, the remaining six official cult members couldn't resist at all. Like a glance, the next moment, a second before the attack is about to come. Even if they roared one after another, they either turned into bulls, fierce tigers, or humanoid crocodiles covered in scales. I wait for greatness. The huge roar was accompanied by the magic energy that directly covered Fang Yuan more than 10 meters away, and it disappeared instantly. You killed the official cult member of Aspia for 34, and got 1341 experience points, the purple rare material shards of Aspia gem. You killed the official cultist of Aspia LV35, and got 1600 experience points, the purple rare material shards of Aspia gem. You killed the official cult member of Aspia for 32, and got 1027 experience points, the purple rare material shards of Aspia gem. You kill. The seven official heretics, from the first shot to the complete annihilation, the whole process took less than 10 seconds. However, until now Xing Mu has not found the boss of this secret realm. Just when he frowned in doubt. There were miserable screams, accompanied by painful but fanatical shouts. A peripheral cultist who was fighting with T-800 suddenly knelt on the ground. Following the sound of We Will Return to Greatness, it exploded into a cloud of blood mist with a bang, and quickly condensed in the direction of the high platform. In the blink of an eye, the secret boss this time appeared in front of Zheng Mu's eyes. A 10-meter-long boa constrictor with a pitch-black body that seemed to be condensed by black mist and flowed like a liquid suddenly appeared. As soon as it appeared, it immediately bitten towards Mirage who was in mid-air. Name, Cursed Snake Aspia's Tentacle. Race, Dark Creature. Level, 437. HP 20W20W. MP, 19W19W. Strength, 582. Agility, 781. Constitution, 1062. Skills, Aspia Curse Max, Rapid Regeneration LV3, Evil God Blood Max, Bliss Illusion LV2, Death Swamp IV1, Physical Immunity V2. Seeing the attributes of the boss, Zheng Mu took a deep breath. 200, 00, 00 Blood Volume. Fucking Fast Regeneration. Zheng Mu almost didn't even think about it and immediately greeted the surrounding mechanical creations, and swarmed towards them. At the same time, above the sky, a violent magical energy in Milaj's hand smashed down on the cursed color that bit his mouth. Dark rage, hit the huge snake head instantly. Blood volume decreased by 3, 2 W. The terrifying attack directly emptied a section of the boss health bar, which also made the latter visibly shocked. On Zheng Mu's side, a happy expression just appeared on his face. Underfoot suddenly turned into a large pitch black swamp. You have entered the death swamp skill range, blood volume minus 100 per second, speed reduced by 50%, stealth skills invalid. Fuck. Zheng Mu was shocked for a moment, burst out with his own strength, and jumped up. The ghost shadow step was deployed, causing his body to fly in midair. However, those T-800s and liquors below obviously feel a lot more uncomfortable. 
losing 100 blood volume per second is simply not something they can bear. And when Zheng Mu rushed to collect these mechanical creations, Mirage entered the countdown with the time, and also started to output crazily from the wolf. Black Magic Wave, Blood Emperor, 1-7-W. Dark Whiplash, HP-2-6-W. Death Sonata, HP-4-1-W. However, one attack after another fell, and in Zheng Mu's eyes, the blood streaks of the cursed snake were like continuous saw blades. Back and forth, although the total has been steadily decreasing. In less than half a minute, it is impossible to consume the opponent to death. And Milaj obviously thought of this too. The next moment, a more majestic magical energy suddenly surged out of his body in midair. However, he used the skill Devil Heart, again. With the surge of magic energy in his body, the transformation time in Zheng Mu's eyes was about to end. It is also an instant change. Magic Battle Puppet Robot Mirage 12 minutes and 44 seconds left in satanic form. Disgusting maggots. Let's see if you can handle it this time. Soul Destroyer. A voice full of tyranny came from the mouth of Mirage in the form of Satan, and the next moment more terrifying energy was triggered, and the humanized shock was revealed in the all-black pupils stained with curses below. There was a sharp hissing sound. Generally, the energy wave of lacquer black emanates from the opponent, sweeping across the audience in an instant. You have acquired the abnormal state Aspia's curse, within one month you will not be able to restore your own HP and MP, and all healing and gain auras will be invalid. You have entered the skill range of Elysium Illusion, and continue to get the abnormal state chaos. Boom! Zheng Mu was still looking at his own information on the panel with a dazed look on his face. The violent energy impact in the next second instantly sent Zheng Mu and the surrounding things flying away. It was as if a large bomb had exploded here. When Zheng Mu climbed up from the pile of debris in disgrace, he was shocked to find that the original high platform had disappeared, replaced by a huge deep pit, and the boss cursed snake that is twisting and covered in black mist. At this moment, the opponent's blood bar of 200 00 was directly dried down to just over a thousand. However, under Zheng Mu's gaze, he quickly recovered 500 HP in just a blink of an eye. With this blood volume recovery speed, the four people in the secret realm cannot exceed the challenge conditions of level 30. Zheng Mu feels that even with four S-level occupations, with reasonable circumstances, without some particularly powerful props and intelligence support, the four S-level professionals would all be stuck here. Seeing Mirage panting violently, he was about to strike again, and it directly killed the other party. In Zheng Mu's mind, a bold idea suddenly popped up. Go, Talon. Cast Mimic on that guy. The next moment, the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet trembled. A pitch-dark crypt suddenly opened up beside the boss's cursed color, and Black Claw's whole body was like a flowing lacquer black liquid that instantly pounced on the opponent's body. Under the effect of the opponent's physical immunity LV2, he directly entered the opponent's interior. Suddenly, the blood bar of the boss cursed snake, which was still recovering rapidly, paused instantly. Under Zheng Mu's ecstatic gaze, streaks of black liquid like tentacles shot out from Black Claw's body, enveloping the cursed snake in just the blink of an eye. It turned into a huge pitch black cocoon. HP 100. HP 172. HP 121. Pausing the growth of the blood bar, it began to slowly fall, and now Mirage, who was nervous and vigilant, was relieved. With the disappearance of the second wave of magic power in the body, the receiving state was lifted. Master President, I'm sorry that I was useless and almost put you in danger. Milaj said with self blame, his eyes were already slightly red. This most sincere emotion made Jing Mu really unable to regard the other party as a mere mechanical creation, he shook his head and smiled to comfort him. What kind of danger is that? It's just a big guy we didn't even think about. Zheng Mu looked at the cursed snake that was steadily reducing its blood volume not far away, his eyes flickered. Even Zheng Mu himself doesn't know how to evaluate his luck. Entered the secret realm twice. It was the first time I met Princess Ruby who could be revived infinitely with a thousand-year-old red coffin. At that time, 
I had Optimus Prime and other purple rare mechanical creations, and I almost fell down. But now, he ran into a boss like the Cursed Snake who could restore 500 horsepower in a second. It's completely unreasonable. Even now, he still has a debuff that cannot be restored by HP and NP. This skill is useless if you put it on yourself, but if you put it on other professionals. As soon as Zheng Mu thought of a team of four professionals coming to challenge, he came up and was directly fired with Aspia Curse. The recovery potion on his body and priest beside him were directly on the spot. Scrapped. There was also the Death Swamp, that swept the audience before, and the Bliss Illusion worker who was ignored by him again and could cause chaos. Zheng Mu frowned and pondered, really wondering, with such a terrifying combination of four, eight, who can pass through such a secret realm. However, whether it is the Millennium Red Coffin, Secret Realm or the current Aspia Cult Stronghold, they are still only difficult level existences under the certification of Heavenly Tao. Going up the Secret Realm, there are still Hell Level and District Dream Level. How does this work? Not normal, very not normal. Just as Zheng Mu frowned and thought, the huge black cocoon in front of him finally shattered with a bang. One after another, or purple, or red light clusters burst out from it. You killed the boss cursed snake Aspia's tentacles, LV37, you got 27, 4W experience points. You have obtained the red hero level material blood of evil god. You have obtained the red hero level equipment Budu royal soul. You have obtained the only skill tree no picture transformation for a mechanic. You have obtained the special item Aspia cult log. You broke the curse of the world one, congratulations on getting the point of heaven one. Current Tiandao point, 3. Zheng Mu squinted his eyes, temporarily ignoring the equipment and materials dropped all over the place, and temporarily not paying attention to the Dao point that had appeared three times. Immediately called up the information of Black Claw in front of him. Name, Liquor Black Claw. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Zheng Mu. Level, Red Brave Class. Durability, 5W5W. Defense power, 2652. Seeing the other party's message, Zheng Mu's pupils shrank, and a flash of disbelief flashed in his eyes. Unexpectedly, Black Claw, who had just been upgraded to the purple rare level a few days ago, would be upgraded again because of devouring the cursed snake of the boss. Upgraded directly from the purple rare class to the red brave class. However, it's not over yet. But Zheng Mu saw the opponent's skill bar. Skill 8, Evil Energy Matrix. Chapter, 80. Skill 8, Evil Energy Mother Body, the Liquor Black Claw, can infect other liquors of the same type with evil energy, greatly improving its combat ability, and at the same time, summon and bind all infected bodies, no cooling time. Until the time when the Black Claws brought all the loot dropped by the boss to Zheng Mu in front of him with a black mist full of evil sense. Zheng Mu gradually recovered from the other party's sudden promotion. Today's Black Claw, except that it is a beast-shaped robot with four claws on the ground, which is the same as the liquor, it is almost difficult to see traces of the liquor in other aspects. Especially the opponent's attributes and skills. Little Heisey, you are really promising. Ha ha ha. After the shock, great joy welled up in my heart. Holding the black claws, the head that was no longer ugly, but full of violent aesthetics, shook violently. The Talon, which has been upgraded to the Red Brave class, obviously has an upgraded intelligence core. At this moment, after hearing Zheng Mu's praise, he shook his head excitedly, and then seemed to think of something. Suddenly, he yelled at the liquors around him. Accompanied by a royal roar, it echoed in a messy secret realm. The liquors around came to Black Claw one after another, and crawled on the ground obediently. The energy on the ladder suddenly surged, stretching out streaks of black energy, rushing into the bodies of these liquors in an instant. In just the blink of an eye, the liquors who were originally standard silver and white bodies were dyed into lacquered black one after another, with black energy like black claws rising from their bodies. However, it's not over yet. As the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet trembled, the black claws got into it the next moment, just when Zheng Mu didn't know why. The liquors who had been casted by Black Claw Fell Energy Matrix, rushed into the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet one after another. Fuck. 
In an instant, Zheng Mu now understood what it meant to be bound to the liquor in the skill fell energy matrix. Originally, I could only hide the shadow mechanics, skill of a mechanical creation, but because of the blessing of this skill, it directly turned him into a population of liquors with him. From the perspective of skill information, there is no problem with the number of bindings for Black Claw. That is to say 09. Zheng Mu's eyes lit up, and he thought that with a wave of his hand, tens of thousands of liquors rushed out of the shadows, forming a wave of steel beasts, rushing towards the enemy overwhelmingly. That kind of scene, who sees who is not confused. Shaking his head, he packed up all the things that could be packed in the secret realm. It is to leave directly from the secret realm. Outside, when Zheng Mu appeared again, the cave behind him was followed by a burst of light. Slowly from real to virtual, and then disappeared directly. While riding Optimus Prime towards the teleportation array in the nearby city, Zheng Mu silently took out the harvest in the secret realm this time. The inventory began. The low-grade material Zheng Mu just glanced at it, and then casually threw it in the storage space. First of all, the gem fragments dropped by the seven official cult members. There are a total of seven purple rare-level light groups, the moment Mu just took them out. It is in a burst of light, condensed together. Aspia Orb, purple rare-level special treasure, one of the admission certificates of the underground world, holding this item can enter the underground world without any obstruction. Note, it has internal identification function, please do not discover it by Aspia cultists. Zheng Mu frowned suddenly, the underground world. What is that place? In addition to this underground world, Zheng Mu also thought of the origin of the three things he saw when he was collecting materials at the resource office, all of which came from a place called a different dimension. Also, don't be discovered by Aspia cultists. That is to say, this Aspia cult is not a monster organization descended from the common heaven. It is an existence that truly has a leader and can fight against professionals. More and more doubts made Zheng Mu frown. But then I can only put things away for the time being. Blood of Evil God, Red Hero Level Material, the Blood of Evil God Aspia, possesses extremely strong evil power, and contains the power of curse that ordinary people cannot bear not recommend it. Buddha Yuhuan, a growth type Red Hero Level weapon, which can continuously refine the blade by killing creatures and devouring souls, increasing attack strength and skill amplification. Note, this is a weapon cursed by evil god. The user you will surely suffer from the burning pain of your soul, and finally be controlled by weapons and become a puppet. No picture modification max, the only skill of a mechanic, which can be used on any mechanical creation. After using it, there will be a certain probability that it will become a higher level mechanical creation, a mechanical component, or be scrapped on the spot. Cooling time, one hour. Zheng Mu was speechless, the two red hero level items were both unusable by him. Fortunately, there is also a mechanic's unique skill, which is very eye-catching. It has already made Zheng Mu think of countless usages. Then Zheng Mu flipped through the Aspia cult journal casually. In addition to recording some information about biological transformation experiments, it also described a news that surprised Zheng Mu. In the stronghold that I just eliminated, the cursed snake of the boss is only a part of evil god's body. On the blue star, there are still many strongholds in the secret realm, where similar research and rituals are going on. Hiss, aren't these big pits one after another? Zheng Mu muttered until he returned to the Southwest Military Military University in the teleportation array, and the thing about the Aspia cult still lingered in his mind. Boss, are you finally king? In the dormitory, Kai Shinkuan seemed to be waiting for him specially. Zheng Mu just appeared, and immediately walked out of his room. And behind him, several S-level male professionals from this year's class were followed by Gu Ming. Zheng Mu nodded. I heard that you went out to perform a mission, how is it, did you gain anything? Zheng Mu was just asking casually, but Kai Shinkuan laughed strangely instead. Boss, do you know that you have lost a lot? When you left, you didn't say you brought your phone. We encountered a secret realm. A difficult six-man team secret realm, ha ha ha. Hearing this, Zheng Mu paused when he was about to unlock the lock, and frowned when he looked at the smiling people. You passed? Yeah, although it's a bit difficult, it's only a bit. Kai Shinkuan blinked his eyes, 
and patted the equipment that Cheng Mu had made for him. The boss is really hard to beat, but I still use the equipment you gave me, the boss, to directly grind him to death, ha ha ha, just blow him up. Zheng Mu nodded and said nothing more. But in my heart, I have already determined that the two secret realms I encountered are definitely TM's problems. They are all difficult level secret realms, if people like Kai Shinkuan and the others meet these two they have met before. I'm afraid the dormitory next door to Zheng Mu will be empty in the future. Boss, are you going out on business this time? Zheng Mu nodded, I also went to a secret realm, and my luck was not bad, and I got a little gain. Having said that, a strange smile appeared on Mu's face. I didn't just contact you back then, you and Ling Bingyue were both busy. Kai Shinkuan. In a good mood, he was most afraid of being compared with a pervert like Xing Mu. After hesitating for a while, Kuei Shinkuan still couldn't hold back his curiosity. Boss, how big is the harvest? Xing Mu shrugged, barely, red brave class. Hiss. Now, not to mention Kai Shinkuan, even Gu Ming and the others looked at Jing Mu with monster-like eyes. Red Brave Class Apart from Jing Mu, who in the entire lieutenant campus has come across something of that level? It's not something they can touch at this level, okay? Everyone looked sour, especially Kai Shinkuan, who felt that he had lost a hundred million. The secret realm that can release red hero level items is at least hell level. Oh, that kind of secret realm, even if you follow the boss to go in and lick some experience, I. Seeing Kai Shinkuan's exaggerated expression, Zheng Mu smiled and shook his head. In other words, the other party said, it's okay to follow him to experience such things once or twice, and Kai Shinkuan himself will lose face if there are too many. Didn't you already start doing tasks outside by yourself during this time? Zheng Mu didn't mention the secret realm anymore, but looked at Gu Feng who was looking at him adoringly. How did you do what you were asked to do? Hearing this, the latter immediately took out two documents from the storage backpack. The location of the guild is only for temporary use because you have explained it to me, boss. I just rented a vacant frontage, which is only a hundred square meters if it is not big. As for this one, this is what you want, boss. Information about all the guilds in the lieutenant campus and their president's information. Zheng Mu nodded, and reached out to take the contents of the guild list. It is not without reason that the lieutenant campus is so chaotic. There are not a few guilds of all kinds, except for a very small number of serious guilds that provide shelter and assistance for daily life occupations, most of the rest are similar to the Sea Dragon Guild. An alliance of gangsters formed by a group of professionals. Add up all kinds of things, there are 128 companies, it can be said that it is a gathering of talents, and the radish has a meeting. Zheng Mu glanced at it casually, and immediately threw the list aside. You go to the guild management office. The guilds on the list, starting from the bottom, all apply for the guild president challenge for me. A game of 100, 0, 0 contribution points will come. One game in half an hour, try to fill me up as much as possible. Gu Feng. When everyone heard Zheng Mu's words, they just felt their heads were empty. Gu Feng was even a little less confident, wondering if he had misunderstood it. Boss, boss, what did you mean just now? One person, challenged the president of a guild every half hour. Non-stop. Zheng Mu nodded, seriousness written all over his face. Well, we'll battle. Car, we'll battle. Kai Shinkuan and the others were shocked by Zheng Mu's decision and didn't know what to say. Boss, will war means that people come to beat you one after another, you challenge others in turn, that should be called what is it called? It seems a little inappropriate to say that it is a group pick. Gu Feng wanted to persuade him, but Zheng Mu had no intention of wrangling over this matter. One game in half an hour is already enough time for those guys to prepare. The reason why he suddenly made such a seemingly crazy decision this time is because the strength of his subordinates has improved on the one hand. On the one hand, it is because, when he is going to challenge Sea Dragon Guild a month later, let the other party become the last guild in the lieutenant campus besides the Wheel of Truth Guild. During this time, he also learned a lot about the guild's contribution points. In the Weiguan campus of Southwest Military Military University, a mature guild with reasonable income and expenditure, although it looks beautiful in itself. 
But apart from the contribution points and resources that need to be distributed to members on a regular basis, it is already very good to be able to leave 1 million contribution points. And like the Sea Dragon Guild, accepting Zheng Mu's previous 10 million contribution point gambling challenge also required time for scheduling and preparation. I only need to challenge and win these 128 guilds once in turn, and all guilds will immediately enter a state of shortage of funds. And if there's a second round, that must be a piece of Haiyan and Heqing, and before the arrival of other new professionals who have completed the assessment, the environment and atmosphere here will be rectified. The Weiguan campus of Southwest Military Military University was directly reversed and reborn. Guild Management Office When Gu Feng came to the Guild Challenge Application Office with the certificate that Zheng Mu gave him, the staff immediately asked which guild and time they wanted to challenge. Gu Feng smiled awkwardly. Asked a little unconfidently. Well, can I take turns challenging multiple guilds at once? The staff was taken aback, but 510 still nodded. There is no limit to this. As long as you are strong enough and have confidence in yourself, you can challenge more than twice a day. Gu Feng looked at the list of guilds in the lieutenant campus handed over by the other party, but coughed embarrassingly. With his personality, he really can't do things like today. Once he speaks out, he will definitely be the focus of the audience, even the laughing stock. If it weren't for the confidence in Jing Mu's strength in his heart, Gu Feng would definitely hold him back. Ahem, we are not challenging one or two, we want to challenge all of them. Well, all battles. The staff member nodded, and was about to operate in front of the computer, but suddenly froze. What did you say? All. The voice of the staff was very loud, and it happened that there were quite a few people who came here to do business today, and suddenly a pair of puzzled eyes looked over. Student, I hope you can understand that the guild challenge is not the battle class training you imagined, there may be a possibility of disability, and even if there is no control. Well, death is not impossible. A guild that has only been established for a few days, I advise you to go back and familiarize yourself with the strength of each guild. One guild challenges all guilds. Classmate, are you delaying? Missing our time. Hearing the staff's fierce criticism, Gu Feng blushed at the moment, and at the same time, he had already noticed the strange gazes from around him. That kind of gaze seemed to be looking at a fool and a psychopath. Almost when he was thinking about going back and persuading Zheng Mu, Zheng Mu's firm and confident eyes suddenly appeared in his mind for some reason. Immediately, Gu Feng gritted his teeth and slammed the table in front of him. Snapped. What the president of our Wheel of Truth Guild has said, it is decided. I thank you for the reasonable suggestion you gave us in the work itself, but I'm sorry, we don't accept this suggestion, please help us to apply for the challenge quickly. After saying this, Gu Feng seemed to have relieved a heavy burden in an instant. He pointed firmly at the list in front of him. Starting from the last Assault Rain Guild, our Wheel of Truth has applied for a guild leader duel with their guild leader at 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, with a bet of 100 00 contribution points. The staff are stunned. Some people watching around heard the Wheel of Truth, which was just established some time ago, but it threatened to launch a challenge to the strongest guild in the Weiguan campus, Sea Dragon Guild in a month. Newcomers Guild In an instant, there was already a picture in my mind. There were constant chattering and chattering, but Gu Feng raised his finger slightly, pointed to the list, and pulled it up. Starting from 8.30, an application challenge will be determined for us every half an hour. Just follow this list, from bottom to top. All are full. Hearing the words, everyone understood in an instant. Damn it! Are all the rookies so stubborn now? What kind of iron is it? It's probably because the brain is broken by the door. Chapter 81. Damn it! Are all the rookies so stubborn now? What's the irony? It's probably because the door was pinched by the brain, right? TSK TSK TSK, the guild has only been established for a few days, and the person has just entered school for a few days. He dared to challenge the presidents of so many of our guilds in turn. This is really not paying attention to us seniors. Damn it, are these newbies for real? Isn't our guild also being challenged? Gu Feng's tough words stirred up waves at the guild management office. 
it attracted a circle of onlookers and discussions from the old students in the Weiguan campus. No one thought that Gu Feng was actually serious. Until he completed the BET confirmation form for the application assessment in public. After the staff silently completed the application notification in the background. Everyone looked at the 128 receipts in Gu Feng's hand, and gradually realized that this strange phenomenon before them was not a joke. Well, this guy is probably holding their guild's guild leader certificate, trying to trick that person. A person looked at Gu Feng's back as he walked away, and asked in a low voice. Immediately, the eyes of everyone at the scene lit up. This proposal is more appropriate than a new leader who really challenges all their guild leaders. Fuck. Doesn't that mean that the 100W contribution point is to bend down to pick up stones? When everyone heard the words, their eyes were full of fiery colors. Especially those who were ranked by the several guilds on the scene were directly and excitedly swaying. When will such a good thing like TM fall on the heads of these little vegetable-grabbing guilds? But Gufong challenged the order of the applications just now, and everyone was watching. It's from the very end of them. In an instant, there was a crash, and these people scattered like birds and beasts. All of them rushed towards the gate of the guild management office. Everyone has only one thought in their hearts. Promise. If you don't agree to this transaction, even God Nitian will not accept it. Especially the guild members who ranked in the bottom 10 were the most excited. 100 W. Ah. On the same day, Jing Mu, a well-known A-level mechanic, raised his arms and shouted, The pseudonym is so clever that I got the full support of more than 2,000 newcomers. All took out their first month's contribution points. The operation of collecting 100 W contribution points on the spot is still vivid. Before, they were still envious, jealous and hated, see Dragon Guild usually just eat meat, but now they suddenly got such a huge windfall. However, now this windfall is about to fall on their heads. The president of the Wheel of Truth, an A-level new professional, and a mechanic, Jing Mu, applied for a battle with all the guild presidents of the lieutenant campus, and the start time of each assessment was only half an hour apart. This crazy news doesn't even need someone with a heart to spread it. On the same day, it became the most popular search on the Weiguan campus. A facade with the sign of a salt rain guild and also sells some consumables needed for fighting monsters and going out part-time. When a member of the club management ran back and brought this shocking and happy event. Xiao Ruding, who is the president of the trade union, did not believe it. 6. Now I'm worrying about the distribution of our contribution points next month, so don't make such unnutritious jokes at this time. Xiao Ruding shook his head, lowered his head and was about to continue looking at the account book in hand. Suddenly, the student's mobile phone in his pocket rang suddenly. When he took it out and saw the latest email from it, he was stunned. Damn it! The Wheel of Truth really challenged us. Hearing this, other guild members around gathered together one after another. One, ten, one hundred, one thousand, ten thousand, one hundred thousand fuck. It's really a million contribution points, and it's written in the email that it has been paid in advance. Those newcomers are really crazy. Boss. Hurry up and promise, promise. After this village, there will be no such shop. Looking at the guild members who were boiling instantly, Xiao Ruding frowned slightly. With a bitter expression, he pointed to the account book in front of him. One million contribution points, all your resources for the next month will be counted, plus the wealth accumulated by our guild in the past two years, the sum will only be this number. However, as soon as the words fell, these members waved their hands hastily. President, this is a free contribution point. Isn't it just a month's worth of resources? We are temporarily suppressed by the guild management office, what are you afraid of? That's right, President, no matter what you say, he is still LV39. That Cheng Mu is only about level 20 at the top of the sky. You can directly force him for more than one round. President, it's done. If we don't accept this deal, there will be no place for us to hang out in the lieutenant campus from now on. Hearing the support of everyone, watching the teaching of the 1 million contribution points in the email. Finally, Xiao Ruding still gritted his teeth, and accepted the email reply. 
this kind of thing happened quickly in other trade unions. For example, the presidents of the trade unions at the bottom of the ranking, after hearing about this incident, chose to accept it as quickly as possible. And also made the same choice, there are also top-ranked guilds. In their words, these newcomers don't know how to respect their seniors at all. Even if you can't share the 10 million contribution points, let these guys learn a lesson. However, among these guilds, Heilong Guild, who heard the news, felt very uncomfortable. Brother, brother, something is wrong, brother. When Wang Jia first heard the news, he didn't believe it, but when the news spread that more and more guilds accepted the challenge, he finally couldn't sit still. Wang Hai looked at his frizzy younger brother, but his expression was gloomy at the moment. In front of his desk, the mobile phone is being thrown aside indiscriminately. Obviously, he has also received news of the challenge. Wang Hai was in a very good mood at first, and today he led someone to complete a task from the military that required to eliminate monsters in an area and reduce the density of monsters in the area. After completing it, he was rewarded with a large contribution point. Although it is said that there is a lot to be distributed to his subordinates, what falls into his own hands is enough for him to give himself a good equipment and update it. However, such a good mood, along with the 100 W contribution points that should belong to them. After flying from the front, there was nothing left in an instant. Seeing the expression on the elder brother's face at this moment, Wang Jia also looked angry. Brother. From my point of view, those guys are playing tricks on us. They just saw that this contribution point is absolutely impossible to keep. All the methods they deliberately thought up, such as establishing a guild, are just to make us lose this contribution point. Brother, let's recruit some people and come over and teach them a lesson. Wang Hai glared at him. This younger brother has never made him feel at ease. Okay. Now what's the use of coming to your door? They have handed over the contribution points to the guild management office, you are going to trouble them now, believe it or not, those guilds at the bottom of the ranking will jointly report our guild to the top. Hearing Wang Hai's words, Wang Jia was a little sluggish. Then, let's just watch it like this. Wang Hai pondered for a long time, and finally his eyes gradually changed from ice cold to revealing a little murderous intent. Picked up the collection on the table and replied in the mail to accept the challenge. At first I thought that Jing Mu was a character, but now it seems contribution points and people, there is always something in our hands, isn't it? In the Wheel of Truth Guild. Are you crazy? Or are you all crazy? Why don't you stop this kind of thing? When Ling Binyue received the news, she found this place immediately. Seeing Zheng Mu, who was still drinking wine leisurely and facing a T-800 who didn't know what he was doing, he finally couldn't help it anymore and yelled loudly. Later, seeing Kai Shinkuan and others beside him, Ling Binyue's expression became even uglier. Kai Shinkuan lowered his head and muttered softly. It's not that you don't know the strength of the boss, no matter how hard you fight, the big deal is to release the base, let's. Enough. Lang Binyue snorted coldly and gritted his teeth. Looking at Zheng Mu at this moment, he has a serious expression on his face. The school does not allow you to use that mechanical creation in the campus. What are you going to fight with so many guild masters? I have specifically investigated, even if it is the opponent you will face in the first duel. Xiao Ruding, the leader of the Charge Rain Guild, has a full level of 39, and he is also an A-level professional Thunder Spearman. And when everyone heard Ling Bingyue say that Jing Mu couldn't use the mechanical creation of the Red Bravery class, everyone lost their composure for an instant. Boss, boss, you really can't use the base. But, why? Is it still possible to withdraw the challenge now? No, all guilds have already accepted it, and we have paid all our contribution points. Is it time for TM to manage contribution points? The boss can't use the base, and those grandsons will definitely take the opportunity to kill him. No, I'm going to find instructor he. He may have a way. Kai Shinkuan was in a hurry, he was really in a hurry. He had no idea that there was such an inside story, otherwise he would have stopped Cheng Mu from finding trouble with these guilds, not to mention the exaggerated half-hour round of will racing. Fuck. How the hell is this playing? 
Seeing everyone's reaction like this, Zheng Mu was very calm, and directly drank the cocktail in the glass in one gulp. Looking around with a smile, he asked quietly. Although you care about me so much, I'm very moved, but so in your eyes, am I just mentally retarded? As he spoke, he shook his head, with a faint smile on his face, as he passed by Ling Binyue. But suddenly he stretched out his hand to wrap his arms around the opponent's slender waist, and walked towards the outside of the guild without the latter thinking about it at all. Sister Binyue, Mu Big Brother is so touched, come, come, I want to reward you. The next day. It was only six or seven o'clock in the morning, and at this moment in the largest arena in the Weiguan campus, the stands were already full of people. Among them, even a few people were still killing monsters in the wild to upgrade or complete tasks yesterday. Today, he ran back in a hurry, just to see with his own eyes how capable the newcomers who don't pay attention to their seniors and sisters are. And similarly, as members of the Wheel of Truth Guild, all two zero zero people came to the scene early in the morning. However, maybe the fact that Zheng Mu couldn't use that powerful mechanical creation yesterday had already spread among the crowd, but at this moment, the faces of these people were full of apprehension and tension. Are the senior officials of the Southwest Military Military University really in a normal mind? Zheng Mu is a dignified mechanic, why can't he use his own mechanical creations? Isn't this unreasonable, isn't this bullying our big brother, who is an honest person? Jiang Lan Lan sat at the front, talking endlessly at the moment. However, she also urgently used some family relationships last night, but in the end, she has not made any real reply until now. It seems that he was also dismissed by the senior officials of Southwest Military Attaché University. This made her instantly dissatisfied with this place. Gritting his teeth angrily. Xiao Feng, whichever guild member hurts your little uncle later, write it down for me. I will make them dare not leave the campus of Southwest Military Officer for the rest of their lives. Hearing the murderous words of the young lady Jiang Lan Lan, everyone sitting next to her was shocked. This girl is really crazy, even the people of the Southwest Military Military University. This above board threatened to deal with. However, some of the people present at the scene with big families also began to think silently. Make a note of the guy who hurt Jing Mu. Eight o'clock seemed to be approaching. The figure of Zheng Mu never appeared, which made Xiao Ruding, who had already entered the arena, frown slightly. But he wasn't in a hurry, anyway, if the time came, if people didn't come, it would be regarded as abstention. The 100 W contribution points still belonged to them. Thinking of the 1 million contribution points being credited immediately, Xiao Ruding couldn't help feeling a little disgusted with the spear in his hand. Hey, old buddy, it's not that I like the new and dislike the old. Although you are also at the purple rare level, after all, it's only level LV30 equipment. I'm already level 39 now. Just when Xiao Ruding had already beautifully started to fantasize. Suddenly there was a loud noise. Zheng Mu is here. In an instant, all eyes converged towards the entrance of the arena. Figures of Zheng Mu and Kai Xingkuan walked out from the entrance. Boss, are you really sure? Kai Xingkuan still couldn't hold back and asked another question, but Zheng Mu didn't answer, and just strolled into the arena in a leisurely manner. Personnel on both sides are in place. A referee from the law enforcement department took a deep look at Zheng Mu who stood upright, took a deep breath, and shouted. The distance between the two sides was more than 10 meters, Xiao Ruding's face was full of confident smiles, holding a spear at this moment, his body was entwined with electric arcs, and his broken hair was shaking in the wind. This is an appearance posture that he specially thought of last night. However, Jin Mu standing opposite him was wearing a simple dark red windbreaker, not even a shadow of a weapon on his body. I didn't see all kinds of packing, armor, and the like. At this moment, the referee backed away, put his hands in his trousers Li Qianhao, pockets, and stood quietly on the spot. Like a handsome man who is meditating on the philosophy of life. Humph. Are you going to surrender right from the start? Although you gave us one million contribution points, people like you who don't know how to respect seniors still eat it honestly. Take it easy. Xiao Ruding snorted coldly in his heart. The next moment, with the referee saying the duel begins. 
The sound of thunder exploded on Xiao Ruding's body, his body moved forward, and he lunged standardly. The spear in his hand seemed to feel it. This would be its last battle. Under the scorching sun in the morning, the cold light flickered and the thunder trembled. With one move, the spear was shot like a dragon, and the terrifying explosive force instantly exploded from one of Xiao Ruding's feet. Boom! Almost in the blink of an eye, Xiao Ruding had already come to a place three to four meters in front of Xing Mu, the sharp thunder was piercing, and he seemed to have seen himself. Holding 100 W contribution points. Be a hero and accept the praise and flattery of other members of the guild. Once Xiao Ruding made a move, he used his full strength. Once the guild battle was confirmed by both parties, they would accept the possible casualties in the duel by default. Xiao Ruding never thought about such a thing as keeping hands. The audience at the scene saw that Xiao Ruding was about to stab the spear into Zheng Mu's body, but the latter still seemed to be dumbfounded, standing where he was, with his hands in his trouser pockets. Among. There was neither a counterattack nor any intention of dodging. They all shook their heads in disdain. Sure enough, Zheng Mu was tricked by the person who signed up. He is a mechanic and has no means of attack. It is useless to have a weapon without corresponding skills. It's gone. The guild leaders on the challenge list don't need to play anymore. Go directly to collect contribution points. Damn it, why didn't such a good thing happen to us? Hey, it's me in the 11th guild, just cry to death. Just when some people were about to get up and leave, the shadow under Xing Mu's feet suddenly trembled in the field. A fierce and terrifying black shadow burst out in an instant let. Chapter, 82 A sharp and terrifying black shadow rushed out instantly. His solid body directly hit Xiao Ruding's chest with the empty door wide open. The latter had the calmness and chicness of a battlefield vanguard one second on his face, but the next moment, the huge impact directly made his body hunched in midair. The color of self-confidence in a pair of eyes has not dissipated yet and the next second, it will hang out of the eye sockets without being hit by the huge impact. Boom! Looking at the terrifying monster that suddenly appeared in front of him, Xiao Ruding's blood bar dropped by one section. Roar! The deafening roar of the beast came from the mouth of a liquor, making Xiao Ruding, who was already a little dizzy from the sudden attack, not have time to react at all. What a chic posture in the last second! The next moment, the liquors who rushed out suddenly rubbed against the ground, how embarrassing it was. Damn! What the hell is this? Fuck! What happened, where did this guy come from? I, I didn't pay attention, I thought this guy was going to die. Quick, look quickly, Xiao Ruding seems to be unable to hold on anymore. In the stands, many people stood up involuntarily, all of them were shocked, staring at the situation in the field without blinking. From the beginning of the battle, it completely exceeded all of their expectations. Previously, his posture was sharp and imposing, and as soon as he stood there, he completely crushed Xiao Ruding, who was empty-handed Jing Mu. This should be the first lucky one to get the 100 W contribution points today. However, the lucky one now, at this moment, is like a girl who is being invaded by a beast and is struggling to support her. Holding up the long spear that should have been replaced in his hand, he kept gritting his teeth to resist. But with the waving of the liquor's thick arms and sharp claws above his head, he was suppressed again and again. Zheng Mu's eyes were calm, and he was even chewing the chewing gum he bought specially after breakfast. At this moment, Xiao Ruding, who was wrestling with the liquors on the ground, was no longer a challenger. It is Zheng Mu's touchstone for the upgraded mechanical creations under his command. Sure enough, even though Common's liquors are still blue elite level mechanical creations, their strength, agility, and durability are all much stronger than before they were transformed by Black Claw. Now it's just about strength. It has already been able to suppress the non strength heavy warrior of LV 39. Zheng Mu was chewing gum, thinking secretly. Ah! Damn it! Thunderstorm! On the ground, Seeing the ferocious sharp teeth and the cold steel claws getting closer and closer to him, and his arms began to feel sore, Xiao Ruding finally gritted his teeth. The next moment violent thunder erupted from his whole body. In an instant, the liquor who was suppressing him was swept away. 
For 37 the latter was attacked by the thunder, and the body on his body stagnated for a short time. Although it was only an instant, it also successfully gave Xiao Ruding a chance to break free from the monster in front of him. Seeing a few tumbling, cold sweat covered his face, Xiao Ruding looked at him vigilantly. Zheng Mu nodded and murmured. Although it can be physically suppressed to a certain extent, generally speaking, even after being infected by fell energy, blue elite level liquors are not enough to deal with a professional at the level of 439 alone. Xiao Ruding was slightly out of breath, looking like Xing Mu's eyes were full of coldness. What is this? Standing on this dual field under the guise of someone else's hand, even if you win, you will be sanctioned by the guild management. Zheng Mu was startled, and saw the referee's eyes. Silently revealed part of the information about the liquor in front of him. When the old students in the stands saw the mechanical creation, they all opened their eyes wide in surprise. To be honest. They have seen summoned beasts, puppet masters dolls, and some zombies raised by the exorcists themselves. These are occupations that use external strength to improve the overall combat effectiveness. However, it was the first time they had seen the mechanical creation of the mechanic. Hiss, it turned out to be a person with two brushes. Mechanics have been useless for so many years, but this is the first time I've heard of someone making a mechanical creation. Hee <laughs> hee, so what, it's just taking advantage of the sneak attack to make Xiao Ruding look ugly temporarily. Let's see, Xiao Ruding has obviously been pissed off now. Sure enough, when everyone looked at Xiao Ruding, the latter's face was already undisguised, full of killing intent. Boy, I have some skills, it seems that this year our Southwest Military Military University really has a great person. He spoke words of praise, but the icy killing intent, and the eyes that kept looking at the vital parts of Zheng Mu's body showed that at this moment Xiao Ruding was really murderous. Zheng Mu didn't seem to hear the chill in the other party's words. Nod. Well, President Xiao, your strength is not bad. Xiao Ruding. Ho ho ho, ha ha. Hearing Zheng Mu's compliment, Xiao Ruding's previously deliberately controlled expression was instantly filled with anger and ferocity, and the next moment, a phantom of a thunder warrior wearing a battle armor suddenly rose behind him. Under the blessing of this phantom, Xiao Ruding came to Zheng Mu almost in the blink of an eye. Facing the blocking liquor, an afterimage flashed across the spear in his hand. The latter's huge metal body flew out directly. Go to hell. The sharp tip of the gun pierced the vital part of Zheng Mu's heart. The face of the referee specially sent by He Guang suddenly changed wildly. He wanted to step forward to stop it at this time, but it was already too late. He never expected that after Xiao Ruding became angry, he would be so impulsive. It is so obvious that it will kill people directly. Hurry up and hide. In desperation, the referee hurriedly yelled a reminder. However, at the next moment, under the astonished gaze of everyone, another black figure suddenly rushed out from the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet at a familiar angle and at a familiar timing. Ah! Xiao Ruding let out a scream, and one arm was bitten tightly by the second liquor who appeared suddenly. The sharp dagger-like fangs directly bit his arm. Blood splattered, and HP also dropped a section after the previous one. Xiao Ruding's eyes were about to burst, and he exerted force on his feet suddenly, trying to restrain this powerful inertia. But he didn't want to, the liquor who was thrown out by him at this time already roared and came from him. Ah! Thunder Gunner's mystery, killing the enemy in all directions. Under the clear sky, a thunderbolt exploded and landed on Xiao Ruding's body in an instant. In an instant, it exploded in all directions. Xiao Ruding was panting violently. He escaped from death twice successively, and the skills he used also consumed a lot. However, looking at the two liquors who were forced back by him, a sneer appeared on the corner of his mouth again. Save one hand, right? It's indeed a smart move. If it weren't for my level advantage, I would have lost to you today. However, do you think it's just because of these two iron lumps? Can you beat me? Zheng Mu's eyes widened slightly, and suddenly, as if thinking of something, he raised his hand and looked at the watch on his wrist. Ah, I really want to thank you for reminding me that we only have half an hour. Xiao Ruding tilted his head, as if he didn't understand what Jing Mu meant. 
The next moment, the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet trembled violently. Under everyone's inconceivable gaze, one head, two heads, white head. In the blink of an eye, there were only two liquors on the field in the original version, which directly doubled by ten times. Twenty liquors with sharp claws and fangs shining coldly surrounded Xiao Ruding. The latter's eyes were dull, and the hand holding the spear in his hand began to tremble slightly. You. Just as he was about to say something, the next moment, the liquors who surrounded him all flew towards him amidst a roar that shook the sky. It drowned him in an instant. Ah! The shrill howling sound caused the bodies of many people at the scene to tremble violently, blood splattered on the dual field, like prey surrounded by a group of predators. In just the effort of breathing, severed hands and broken bones flew out of the frenzied crowd of liquors. Xiao Ruding's screams were still there, but when the onlookers looked in the direction of the referee, they were shocked to find that the referee should have decisively stopped the duel when the duel could be over. At this moment, at some point, she silently put on a pair of sunglasses and even plugged in a pair of earphones. Staggering, it was actually in front of the bloody scene on the scene, swimming in the ocean of music. In an instant, the presidents of some guilds present seemed to have thought of something, and their faces were gloomy and terrifying. For the newcomer professionals, seeing Xiao Ruding's dismembered body torn apart, except for a very few people who turned their heads slightly and chose to ignore, most of them stared at the scene with expressions of hatred. This is not a world of civilization a Jeff, and what we believe in here is the law of the jungle. Even for newcomers like them, it is not the first time they have seen blood. Kai Shinkuen and others were the ones who could see the obvious killing intent of Xiao Ruding when he attacked just now. At this moment, I saw that this guy was directly dismembered by Zheng Mu. Everyone raised their arms and shouted excitedly. Boss is awesome. Fuck Xiao Ruding. You are so fucking awesome. Ha ha ha. Compared with the joy and excitement of the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild. The members of the Charging Rain Guild, however, had their legs go limp, and they slumped directly on the seats in the stands, their eyes glazed over, and they muttered in their mouths. It's over, it's all over. Chairman Xiao Ruding was finished, and their one million contribution points naturally changed to another owner. It wasn't until Zheng Mu lightly raised his hand, surrounded Xiao Ruding's body, and the biting liquors finally gradually dispersed, revealing the horribly broken corpse. A liquor brought Xiao Ruding's spear over, and Zheng Mu looked at the attributes of the spear. LV-30 purple rare level weapons are pretty good weapons in the lieutenant school, but it's a pity. It's useless to put it in your own hands. Walking a few steps behind him, under the gaze of his eyes, Zheng Mu suddenly thrust the spear belonging to Xiao Ruding into the open space behind him. Seeing the cold light in the scorching sun, the point of the gun still stained with Xiao Ruding's blood, the old students who were originally full of disdain for Zheng Mu all looked solemnly. With the staff of the two dueling fields, the scene was restored in the blink of an eye with skillful movements. Zheng Mu looked at the watch on his wrist, and then looked at the referee who had just taken off his earphones. This man didn't stop just now. Of course, there is a reason for myself. According to He Guang's information, Xiao Ruding has done a lot of things to bully newcomers in the Weiguan campus these years. Sometimes, it might even be because the Charge Rain Guild is known as the most trashy guild, so Xiao Ruding hides a distorted and sensitive heart under his handsome appearance. He has also done evil things such as snatching the achievements of new professionals in the wild, and even killing people secretly. To kill this kind of rubbish, Zheng Mu wouldn't even raise his eyelids. The referee, who received the signal from Zheng Mu's eyes, let out a dry cough and looked as usual. Pretentiously, he opened the folder in his hand and flipped through it twice. 830 Guild Challenge, Steel Bone Guild President Wu Li vs Wheel of Truth Guild President Zheng Mu. The players on both sides are in place. Hearing this, a pair of eyes immediately moved towards a huge muscular man above the stands. The man's complexion changed slightly. To be honest, looking at Xiao Ruding's tragic situation before, the strength difference between the two is actually not that big. Even if he goes up, I'm afraid it's not Jin Mu. Opponent. But the thought that if they give up, the huge loss of 1 million contribution points will make their guild disband directly. The strong man named Wu Li finally took a deep breath, like a moving mountain of meat. 
on to the scene of the duel. His gaze was solemn, without the confidence and arrogance of Xiao Ruding before, his eyes kept looking for loopholes and flaws among the mechanical creations in front of him. Soon, the time arrived as the duel began. After the referee gave an order, he decisively pushed to the edge of the scene. However, this time Zheng Mu did not give the opponent a chance to take the initiative. With a thought, twenty liquors suddenly surrounded Wu Li's huge body and started to swim around in the next moment. Wu Li looked solemn, and gave a low shout. As a B-level professional rock boxer, layers of rock structures immediately appeared on his body as a defense. However, just as the defense was formed, a huge force suddenly came from behind. Stinging, stabbing, the sound of cutting teeth, the blink of an eye is like falling prey into a river full of piranhas. The defense that had just been propped up on his body shattered in the blink of an eye. He roared angrily, waved his fists to create shock waves, and released his skills continuously. He wanted to take advantage of his size and level to forcefully break out of the encirclement. However, the result was that Zheng Mu hadn't even rushed in front of him. With only seven or eight meters away, the opponent's health bar had already dropped to nearly half of it crazily. Just when everyone thought he was going to choose to give up. While Wu Li was struggling to resist, the moment he lowered his head, a ferocious light erupted in his eyes. A whirling knife flew out of his hand, and instantly went straight to Zheng Mu's neck. This is a long-range attack method similar to assassin's sneak attack that comes with his profession. Decapitation Revolving Knife Just when Wu Li and everyone thought that Zheng Mu was doomed this time. After all, the shadow under the opponent's feet didn't move at all. Boom! A huge red and blue steel titan with a height of 8 or 9 meters suddenly appeared in front of Zheng Mu. Just a thick leg directly blocked Zheng Mu. Clang! Wu Li's eyes widened, and he looked up in disbelief, but he didn't wait for him to say anything. It's like trying to gag him on purpose. Optimus Prime, who appeared suddenly, had already fully activated the cannon in his hand. Boom boom boom. Ten rings directly hit Wu Li's inescapable body several times in succession. In the violent explosion, before even a scream could be uttered, it had already turned into flying splatters. Pieces of ground meat. Amidst the pattering footsteps, a liquor brought Wu Li's weapon over again. It is a pair of four thirty purple rare knuckles. This thing Zheng Mu can use directly, and it can increase the basic physical attack power to a certain extent. However Zheng Mu is not a person who likes to punch to the flesh. With a casual throw, the two knuckles were precisely placed on Xiao Ruding's bloody spear point behind him. The audience was silent. From the beginning of the battle to the present, Zheng Mu has almost always stood there with a very relaxed posture, without any defense. Put your hands in your pockets. That appearance, saying that he came to see the play, didn't seem to have any sense of disobedience. Nine o'clock Guild Challenge Main Head Python Guild President Luo Biki vs. Truth Wield Guild President Zheng Mu. Chapter, 83. Ha! Time is passing by every minute and every second. However, unlike the previous duel, when everyone came here impatiently, Xiao Ruding even walked to the arena early, waiting for Zheng Mu to give away his head. In front of everyone, Zheng Mu directly killed the two first guild leaders without raising his hand. The atmosphere at the scene obviously became dignified. Some people were shocked by Zheng Mu's strength and whispered to each other. Some people looked nervous, thinking about how they would deal with the terrifying mechanical creations in a while. There are others who have already begun to gather their equipment anxiously, wanting to arm themselves to the teeth as much as possible. This is the case for Luo Biki, who is going to play next. Quick, third, let me use your pendant that can take a fatal injury, and you, sixth, take off your shoes, hurry up. President Sun, I will offer 120-00 contribution points. Can you sell that staff you were planning to sell to me now? Luo Biki looked anxious, and kept pulling relations with the people around him. Even in order to increase some security, he gritted his teeth and bought some equipment and consumables from others to improve his attributes at a premium. However, Zheng Mu was looking at the watch in his hand, looking a little bored, and had already started yawning again and again. After leaving the guild with Leng Bingyue last night, although he didn't achieve any major achievements. 
but it also took a lot of advantage from this girl. So much so that after returning to the dormitory, Ling Bingyue was still sending some confusing text messages on her mobile phone. For a while they say he is Jing Mu playing hooligans, for a while they say he is a scumbag, for a while they say let him live up to himself. In response to the news, Jing Mu had little rest last night. In the stands of the Wheel of Truth Guild, when Ling Bingyue saw Jing Mu yawning at this moment, she suddenly thought of her behavior last night, and couldn't help but worry about Jing Mu. Jing Mu was too bold last night, he has never had that level of contact with other opposite sex. But being taken advantage of so much by this guy at once, shame and annoyance and other complicated and inexplicable emotions made her forget that Jing Mu had important matters to deal with the next day. I how can I do this? Leng Bingyue looked anxious, but Zheng Mu in the field looked towards the stands helplessly. I said, can you hurry up, my flowers are all withered. Hearing this, Luo Biki, who was familiarizing himself with the new equipment on his body, froze, and then pointed in the direction of the referee with an ugly expression. It's still ten minutes before nine o'clock, what are you in a hurry for? Who would have thought that such meaningless things as procrastinating and challenging time would happen to them? It happened to these hunters who were still full of confidence. The referee also shook his head helplessly. At the same time secretly thought. Where did this freshman Jing Mu come from? He came up so fiercely, and was named and supported by the above. The referee didn't speak, his eyes swept over the stands where the old students were. It can be said that almost three quarters of the guild leaders here today have been tacitly allowed to kill them. Zheng Mu was completely unable to refute by Luo Biki's upright words. Distress and helplessness were evident on his face. Damn it, half an hour is too long, if I had known it, I would have asked Gu Feng to set it every fifteen minutes, no, five minutes is fine. Think about it, if you follow this progress. Challenge a family for half an hour. There are a total of 128 guilds, so it will take a few days to challenge. When Zheng Mu's side was about to fall asleep standing up, nine o'clock finally arrived. Looking at Luo Biki with a dignified expression, who looked like a solo challenge to the boss of a secret realm, Zheng Mu smiled slightly, as if to comfort him and relax. Such a wonderful change of identity, the encouraging behavior of the seniors and the juniors, fell into the eyes of the doctors present. All of them clenched their fists in anger. With the sound of the referee, the duel began. The next moment, Zheng Mu saw Luo Biki waving the staff in his hand, and the equipment on his body was suddenly brightened. In the blink of an eye, circles of magic shields appeared on his body. The powerful magic expels the halo, forcing the liquors flying around to retreat one after another. At the same time, demons appeared one after another on the staff in his hand. The target of the magic attack was Zheng Mu himself who was hiding behind the mechanical creation and had never moved from his position from the beginning. The members of the major guilds in the stands all stared brightly. There is nothing wrong with President Luo's strategy. Use the resistance aura to prevent being approached, and then use powerful attack skills to directly attack that guy Jing Mu himself, once that guy is hit by one move, he will be finished. That's right. It should be this big. That guy has so many mechanical creations. If we really mess with each other, it will not do us any good, and it will only fall into the quagmire. Guild Luo now not only has equipment that can speed up the recovery of MP, but also a lot of recovery potions. Now we only need to keep the resistance halo from being broken, and at the same time continue to attack Xing Mu with a wide range of skills. Always win. On the stands, seeing Luo Biki's fighting style, everyone felt some peace of mind. However, the next second. Pfft. On the dueling field in the early morning, a large head with wide eyes was flying in the air. The mage hat, which can reduce the consumption of skill MP, was purchased for more than a hundred thousand contribution points, and it fell to the ground in a gust of wind. Slap. Looking at the blood splattered, the magic aura on his body disappeared one after another, and the headless corpse lay powerlessly on the ground. The presidents and members of the guilds in the stands froze from the smiles that had just appeared on their faces. Black Claw took heavy steps, and as soon as he appeared, he had already become the focus of the audience. Fuck. Red Brave. 
the boss actually has other red brave mechanical creations. Sang Luo exclaimed, and Gu Ming and other S-level professionals on the side also showed shocking expressions. How long has passed since then, but they have never forgotten the terrifying power of the Transformers base. However, right now Zheng Mu actually has another mechanical creation of red bravery level. Looking at the shape of the opponent, it seems to be an improvement on the basis of the liquor. Black Claw shook his head and came in front of Zheng Mu, as if he was a hound waiting for his master to praise him. A liquor on the side took all the equipment from Sang Luo. Different from Xiao Ruding and Wu Li who left only one weapon before, they suddenly came within the halo of resistance after being cast by Black Claw Dark Crypt. Luo Biki, who had the head of a claw owl, kept all the equipment on his body. Mage hat, earrings, necklace, mage robe, shoes and the V-35 purple rare staff. Zheng Mu glanced at it casually, and inserted the staff in the position adjacent to the spear behind him, so that the liquors, like piles of garbage, threw the rest of the equipment aside and piled them into a pile. Hill. On the stands, it was different from someone who was already excitedly waving the guild flag in his hand, shouting long live the president and boss awesome. At this moment, on the opposite stand, there was no sound. Everyone didn't come to their senses until they saw the staff carrying away Luo Biki's body. Again. Even Luo Biki who played this time was not as good as Xiao Ruding and Wu Li before. One of the two persisted in Zheng Mu's hands for more than 10 minutes, and the other existed for nearly 10 minutes. However, Luo Biki estimated that it would take less than 5 minutes. On the stands, Wang Jia stared blankly at the watch on his wrist. Brother, 3 minutes and 28 seconds. The time at this moment is only 9.03. Wang Hai's expression was solemn and he understood that everyone underestimated Jing Mu, who was regarded as the leader by the 2,000 newcomers, and his eyes were full of awe. Shaking his head slightly. More than. Luo Biki's death was so sudden that no one had time to react. 3 minutes and 28 seconds, that's the time it took for the staff to take away the corpse. His face was extremely ugly, three consecutive presidents were killed by Jing Mu, and the referees on the side didn't say anything. The conjecture in his heart had already been confirmed by him. Obviously, what they are facing is not only Zheng Mu himself, but also the school with his acquiescence and support. In recent years, many middle and high-level forces of Southwest Military Military University have gone out to perform tasks. The situation in the school went from bad to worse, and the Weiguan campus, the initial campus for newcomers, was under the torment of these guilds, which made Southwest Military Military University unable to recruit newcomers. Some punishments in the rules are not enough to deter them, and it is obviously not appropriate for the school to directly deal with all of them it will definitely attract criticism from other first-class universities. Then, Wang Hai stared in horror at Zheng Mu who was yawning boredly because of waiting. This guy is the executioner launched by the school to eliminate all of us. Wang Hai clenched his teeth, but he couldn't figure it out. How could there be such a perverted newcomer in the world? Could it be that the 30-odd and 40-level levels that are shining brightly on their panel at the moment are all decorations, meaningless blank paper that will be broken at once? Wang Hai expressed his incomprehension. Wang Jie also expressed his incomprehension. Those present, the old students all had huge self-doubt about their level and strength at the moment. Even the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild behind Jing Mu had an absurd thought. Those old students are all awesome, but it seems like that's the case. Next, as time went on, one after another the guild leaders began to play. Before each of them went on stage, they all felt the terror of going to the execution ground. At 9.30, the president of the Sea King Crab Guild came on the stage. Two minutes and eighteen seconds later, he was bombarded by Optimus Prime and received a lunchbox on the spot. At ten o'clock, the leader of the guild came on the stage, and nineteen seconds later, the Black Claw 18 suddenly appeared on the hand of the gang eater and chopped off his head. Zero seeking flowers. At ten thirty, the president of the Gu Yuling Guild entered the stage. As an assassin professional, he immediately entered a stealth state as soon as the duel started. Then, after 42 seconds, he was directly torn apart by the swarming liquors. Into pieces. The noon sun was a bit dazzling, 
and Zheng Mu's stomach finally let out a burst of noise. Oh, I was so thoughtless, I forgot to let go foam. That kid spared the time for eating. Zheng Mu sighed. However, he was still in the mood to think about what to eat at the moment. Above the stands, the presidents and members of the major guilds felt chilly all over their bodies under the scorching sun at noon, as if falling into an ice cave. Ruthless. Too ruthless. During the whole morning, except at the beginning, Zheng Mu obviously didn't take action seriously, making Xiao Ruding and Wu Li, the two challengers, persist beyond the ten-minute limit. All the guild leaders who played after that failed to last five minutes. Moreover, Zheng Mu obviously didn't intend to give them a chance to surrender, as long as they played, they would directly kill themselves. Up to now, the staff who were in charge of disposing of the corpses have not left. Stand directly next to the referee. The referee announced the start of the game, and a few minutes later, they went up to deal with the scene. Then there is the waiting time for Zheng Mu to wait like a year, and let the guild leader who is about to play rush to the game. Well, why don't we stop for a while? Have lunch before continuing. Finally, Zheng Mu still couldn't hold back, and asked the referee at the side. Eminem. The latter was startled at first, but then shook his head apologetically, with a look of embarrassment on his face. Student Zheng Mu, our guild battle has regulations. Once it starts, unless one party voluntarily admits defeat, otherwise, it cannot be postponed, nor can the time be changed. Now, I couldn't help but look to the opposite side again. Which one is next? Do you want to surrender? There was no sound. One after another looked at a young man in the crowd in the stands. The guild members beside the latter became anxious when they saw that the boss was scared. Boss, you can't admit defeat. With one million contribution points, our guild will be finished. That's right, President, that kid is obviously mentally deficient, if you let him eat and drink enough to beat him, then there is no hope. President, grit your teeth and try. If you really can't hold on, you will admit defeat on the field, and the brothers will admit it too. Seeing that the young man did not respond for a long time, Zheng Mu shook his head. Hey, the door of life is open to you, but you insist on taking black and white impermanence for a walk-and-go trip. Now, don't expect these guys to give up. After thinking for a while, he beckoned to Kai Shinkuen who was in the stands behind him. The latter immediately ran over in a hurry. Boss, are you hungry? I'm going to buy you food right now. However, Zheng Mu shook his head and whispered into the other party's ear. Hearing this, Kai Shinkuen's expression suddenly became wonderful. After hesitating for a moment, he looked to the opposite side and asked in a low voice. Boss, wouldn't this be a little bad it doesn't seem very polite. Zheng Mu looked at Kai Shinkuen speechlessly. When you were in Yuntong Middle School, you always thought about the guy who was going to have a silver party. Now you are talking about politeness. The black bear is wearing cassock, what kind of monk are you pretending to be? Kai Shinkuen stopped talking and quickly left the duel arena. And just when the next duel was about to start, Kai Shinkuen finally came back. Carrying two large storage backpacks in his hands, there are several beautiful maids behind him. Seeing those figures, Leng Bingyue and the others in the stands turned cold. Leng Bingyue even threw the sweet words that Zheng Mu said to herself last night into the trash can on the spot. As expected, like father, like son. No, this guy is even more extreme than his father, at least his father still gave a heart to a district in a sense. This guy has completely let himself go. Student Zheng Mu, well, the duel is about to start, should the other people in the arena withdraw? When the referee spoke, they were obviously a lot more careful. However, Zheng Mu didn't say anything yet. When everyone saw what Kai Shinkuen took out from the storage backpack, they were shocked on the spot. The guild leader who was about to enter the stage was even more angry and trembling, his face turned pale. It's unreasonable. It's really unreasonable. What is he going to do? I saw that Kai Shinkuen quickly set up the tables one by one, and then like gas tanks, cooking utensils, various ingredients and condiments, they were neatly arranged. This guy even bought a recliner for Zheng Mu. After all this last night, after Zheng Mu nodded, Wu Shinkuen withdrew from the duel arena. 
the referees and other staff were dumbfounded. They had been in this situation for so many years, let alone seen it, they have never survived it. Uh, student Cheng Mu, irrelevant personnel need to evacuate from the venue. Chapter, 84 Um, student Cheng Mu, irrelevant personnel need to evacuate from the venue. The referee looked at a lowly with blonde hair and double ponytails, and directly and skillfully massaged the head of Zheng Mu, who was lying on the recliner, and said hastily in a daze. Zheng Mu was taken aback, then thought of something, and directly displayed some information about the mechanical creations of Tifa and the others. What? The beautiful maid is also a mechanical creature. Damn it! Mechanics can still play like this. This is obviously a living person, how could it be a mechanical creation? Not to mention that the referees and those old students were stunned, those in the Wheel of Truth Guild who had never seen Nan were even more in an uproar. Some people looked exactly the same as normal humans, but at this moment, following Zheng Mu's thoughts, Tifa and others revealed part of their information panels under the investigation of the crowd. They were stunned. Even the referee was speechless when he saw this scene. He stared blankly at Zheng Mu enjoying the massage of a Mary Rose. Tifa on the side is already leading Alice, 2B, and my Shiranui, who are also wearing maid outfits, and start busy cutting vegetables in front of the cooker. This scene, appearing in the scene of this dual field, is as absurd as it is. Ha ha ha, this kid really enjoys it, but I'm afraid these people will be pissed off. On a high platform in the dual arena, two figures are standing here upright. Hearing He Guang's laughter, Qin Ji, who also heard the news, nodded helplessly with a wry smile. This guy Zheng Mu is really weird. The strength is amazingly powerful, and the ideas are weird and novel. But only this kind of person can represent them and complete the cleanup of the lieutenant's campus. In the arena, the absurd scene of Zheng Mu made the youth president who was about to go on the stage turn livid. Without a doubt, this is humiliating. This is naked humiliation. The guy 473 really didn't put us seniors in his eyes. When the latter walked into the arena, the duel began with the referee's cry. The young man swung his staff violently, and in the next moment, bursts of dense starry dots exploded among the liquors. In the violent explosion, smoke and dust billowed. And during this breathing effort, a golden light suddenly lit up on the young man, and in the next moment, it turned into a shooting star at an extremely fast speed, rushing towards Xing Mu's direction. The billowing black smoke provided a good opportunity for his figure to hide. The young man's eyes are full of killing intent. He is an A-level professional star force mage, and the skills he displays have a certain relationship with the stars. He is not weak among the presidents of the major guilds. A full 443, but I am not good at guild management, so the guild ranks low. In perception, on the other side of the black smoke, Zheng Mu's breath is there. The youth skills were displayed again, and the next moment a golden ball of basketball laughing suddenly condensed in his hands. However, just when he had estimated the approximate position and was about to attack Zheng Mu directly, bursts of bursting gunshots suddenly sounded. In the next moment, huge power, intensive and terrifying effects acted on him. The blood volume dropped crazily in an instant. This scene scared him to dodge on the spot. After rushing out of the black smoke, the young man saw the thing attacking him, his face was instantly dark. It was actually a new mechanical creation summoned by Zheng Mu after the previous mechanical creations. Call me when the food is ready, I'll squint for a while. Zheng Mu's voice clearly entered the ears of the young man at this moment. While pouring the recovery potion into his mouth, the latter was thinking about how to break the blockade of the newly appeared T-800. Hearing such a sound, he almost crushed the glass bottle in his hand. He was about to yell. Stab! On the other side, there was a sound of boiling oil in the pan, and the young man turned his head to look. On the other side of the dual field, my Shiranui, who was exploding in stature, was quickly stir-frying in the pan with a spatula in his hand. The clear fragrance spreads across the scene in just a moment. Everyone watching the battle. Wheel of Truth Guild members. Referees and staff. The scene fell into an unprecedented short silence, only the sizzle of Zheng Mu's mechanical maids, who were cooking seriously, spread in the dual arena. 
Bastard! How dare you humiliate me like this! Go to hell! The anger had already shattered the last sliver of rationality of the young man, and his HP hadn't fully recovered yet, so he rushed towards Sheng Mu again. However, at the next moment, with Black Claw's attack, he accurately cast Dark Crypt, from the open space in front of the opponent to block him. In the blink of an eye, the young man was already surrounded crazily by liquors flying around. The miserable howling sound gradually disappeared along with the sound of flesh and blood tearing and bones breaking. Prick, prick, prick. Looking at the other side, the maid group was not affected by the current situation at all, and they were still doing their own things. And Zheng Mu, who looks like he's really about to take a nap, wearing sound isolating headphones and an eye mask. Everyone has forgotten one after another, and another life has disappeared in front of them. All stared blankly at each other. Unknowingly, all the old students present became obviously honest and depressed. It was as if the self-confidence and the arrogance of the whole body were smashed by the magical touch in front of him. Killing people to kill people, really killing people to kill people. Qin Ji shook his head and sighed. It can be foreseen that after the malignant presidents of the lieutenant campus are eliminated, their school will carry out some institutional punishments for individuals in individual guilds. The ethos of the Weiguan campus is bound to take on a new look. Only. I am afraid that these people will not forget it until the moment of death. There was once a man who slept with his eyes closed and beat them so hard that they couldn't lift their heads without doing anything himself. The sound of cooking was constant, and then there were two more guild leaders, one hated the Northwest, and the other seized the gap and directly chose to escape from the venue and surrender. As another president entered the stage, Jing Mu Mary Rose's gentle little hand poked Jing Mu's cheek lightly with her fingers. In the dead silence of the scene, the soft voice of the other party was clearly heard by some people. Master, it's time for you to get up, the meal is ready, master. The men present clenched their fists tightly. How can there be such an unreasonable profession in the world? What grade A chicken ribs? If this kind of battle doesn't have to be fought by oneself, and the beauties are accompanied by professional tasteless, they also want to be this waste. However, compared to the complicated psychology of those men, girls like Ling Binyue who have a crush on Zheng Mu have much simpler ideas. They all gritted their teeth. Scumbag. You are so fucking damned. Mary Rose's massage technique is really good, but like Tifa and the others, the intellectual distance is still a lot short of an existence like Mirage. But these are small things, with the skills of smart component upgrades. As long as he is given enough time, I believe that he will be able to create a full believing Jerusalem made group in a real sense. The food was very popular, even though Zheng Mu was the only one eating, there was still a full table, not counting the soup, there were only seven or eight dishes. Urged by the referee, a burly man stepped forward. Looking at Jing Mu, who was sitting not far away from him, who was feasting, the latter thought that he could bear this kind of humiliation and could choose to admit defeat directly. However, in the end, he silently pulled out the long knife at his waist. Iron King Guild President Zhang Mingxiang vs Wheel of Truth Guild President Jing Mu Hearing the name of this guild, Jing Mu was taken aback. Slightly raised his head, and sure enough, from the stand behind the other party, he saw a familiar figure who had met once. It was the young man whom I and others met when they first came to Southwest Military Military University and wanted to win them over to join the guild. I forgot the specific name, but Zheng Mu remembered it. Among the guild names given to him by He Guang, there was no such Iron Overlord guild. The referee stepped forward, ready to announce the start of the duel. Zheng Mu suddenly picked up the wine glass on the table and filled it up under everyone's gaze. Toast the other party far away, and then sprinkle it on the ground under the angry gaze of the other party. You guys are the first guild names I've heard of since I came here. Well, go all the way. Zhang Mingxiang's instant anger was instantly ignited. Following the referee's order, the next moment, the whole person roared violently, directly turning into a small steel titan over five meters tall. But the next moment, Optimus Prime's melting knife suddenly protruded, and the scorching blade instantly slashed at the opponent's body. Ah! The screams and violent gunshots sounded again in the dual field. In the blink of an eye, 
Zhang Mingxiang, who had just successfully transformed and was about to launch an attack, was directly crushed by Optimus Prime, like beating a child, so smashed that he couldn't lift his head. Seeing the liquor crawling all over his body, the sharp claws scratching the opponent's steel body, the blood bar kept falling. Zheng Mu was sitting at the table, enjoying the feeding from Tifa and the others. Take a sip of wine from time to time. It seems that he is not participating in any duel in the duel field, but listening to music in a leisurely and comfortable gulen. And Zhang Mingxiang, who had been completely knocked down to the ground and couldn't get up because of his huge body, just happened to see this scene. In an instant, the hysterical roar directly penetrated the entire duel arena and spread beyond the duel arena. Zheng Mu. You fucking look at me. You fucking look at me. Damn you. Damn you. Zhang Mingxiang yelled again and again, being completely ignored by others, and the fact that he was humiliated in public under the eyes of everyone happened to him. For these proud and arrogant guild leaders. It is definitely more uncomfortable than killing them. Soon, as the durability of the transformation skill on the ladder finally shattered, the opponent's body returned to its original state. He didn't even have a chance to get up and escape from the scene, but he was chopped into two pieces by the black claw on the spot. Next. Zheng Mu's expression was as normal as usual, and he was surrounded by fierce spirits. He had already dealt with the mechanical creations of an unknown number of guild leaders. In an instant, Zhang Mingxiang and Zhang Mingxiang hadn't used up half an hour yet, and the guild leader for the next duel was already terrified. He waved his hands again and again. No, 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 I admit defeat, no more competition, no more competition. Even though he was the first person who chose to admit defeat without a face, at the moment there was no one around to make fun of him. Even the president of the Sea Dragon Guild like Wang Hai couldn't help but think about the relationship with Zheng at this moment. In the battle between animal husbandry and animal husbandry, it is a question of how much chance I have. 100W contributed a lot, but in just over half a day, more than a dozen guild leaders died tragically at the hands of Zheng Mu's mechanical creations. Even if he humiliated Zheng Mu so unscrupulously, he was still full of anger. But compared to their lives, some people finally silently chose the loss of 100 0, 0 contribution points. You can earn more when your contribution points are gone, but if you lose your life. At the same time, in Shindu, in a beautiful and oppressive courtyard surrounded by small bamboo forests, a beautiful figure stood nervously outside the gate of the small courtyard, pacing back and forth. Soon, when an old man came out, he Yun asked hurriedly. Grandpa Lu, how is my father? Did you reply? After seeing the old man smiling and nodding, he Shang Yun finally wept with joy. The effect of the Now Yuan pill is really miraculous. It is worthy of being a treasure of the Red Bravery class. Now your father's mental power has been restored, and it has also been slightly enhanced, but the other attributes of the body. Due to the influence of these years, the sex has declined a little. I prepared some medicines and it will be able to recover after a while. After seeing off the old man, he Shang Yun couldn't wait to run into the room immediately. When he saw that his father, who had been in a coma all this time, was sitting up on the bed and talking to his mother, he Shang Yun finally couldn't control himself anymore. Weeping and throwing himself into each other's arms. He Shang Yun's father, he Yu Feng, was also full of tears. He must have brought a lot of burden to the family after being in a coma all these years. After all, he wanted to keep his previous mental breakdown. The state of the stain does not deteriorate. The required potion consumption is definitely not a small amount. And when Yu Feng heard that the classmate his daughter was talking about, he gave her precious brain Yuan pill without asking any conditions, and he nodded again and again. As if thinking of something, he touched around and found out his storage bag. This thing is bound to a person, and even he Shang Yun and his wife couldn't open it during his coma. The next moment, two scarlet jade stones the size of glass balls appeared in his hands, and they were directly passed into he Shang Yun's hands. This Xie and jade is only a purple rare grade material, not as good as your classmates now Yuan pill, but you give this to him first, it's just a temporary thank you gift from our he family. After recovering completely, thank him personally. In the dual field of the lieutenant campus. 
Seeing the sky getting late, Zheng has already completed nearly 40 consecutive victories. On the stands at the scene, there are many more people at 2 4 at the moment. Some students from the official school officer campus, after hearing about the incident here, came to watch the excitement. TSK TSK TSK, Wang Hai, it seems that you two brothers of the Wang family will lose their position as the boss of the lieutenant campus. You would rather give up promotion to the officer campus than you. The guild you want to keep will not be buried in the hands of a new student in front of you. Hear the voice full of schadenfreude. A flash of anger flashed in Wang Hai's eyes. I won't bother you, Major Li. When he said this, Wang Hai also specially emphasized the word major in his mouth. This person also instantly heard Wang Hai's words, and he was still the major's disdain for him after entering the officer's campus for so long, and his face turned a little cold. Looking at the field, he used several defensive talismans, finally seized the opportunity, and hurriedly called out the guild leader who surrendered. With a sneer. Another trash, Mr. Wang, it seems that according to this speed, it will be your turn to play in three or four days. I must take a good look, our Mr. Wang. Just how strong is the strongest person in this lieutenant campus? After the man finished speaking, a cruel young man who also came from the officer's campus shook his head. I'm afraid it won't take that long, the guild battle between Sea Dragon Guild and Wheel of Truth will be the day after tomorrow. Hearing this, Major Lee couldn't help being slightly taken aback. Colonel Chi, don't they have rounds every half an hour? These 128 guilds will fight from day to night, and it will take several days non-stop, right? Colonel Chi smiled coldly, and glanced at Wang Hai and the others who were sitting there with gloomy faces. Said lightly. The challenges of the Wheel of Truth Guild are not only lined up during the day, they are also full at night. Our new president, President Cheng Mu, has to fight from day to night. Call from night to day. Major Li, what? Chapter, 85 Crack Gu Feng, are you out of your wits? Are you brainless? On the Wheel of Truth grandstand, when everyone saw that the sky was already dark, Cheng Mu just finished a challenge, and they were about to stand up and leave. But it was the sound of the referee calling the person who challenged the next game to enter the field. When Jiang Lanlan knew that this stupid nephew of hers was so stupid that he even filled the queue at night, she was so angry that she started to beat him up on the spot. Where is someone going to have a guild match at night? Jiang Lanlan was annoyed, today Zheng Mu can be said to have stole the limelight, so she specially prepared some advanced red wine, and even booked the best restaurant and hotel in Shindu. Just thinking about going directly in front of Lang Bingyue, a little bitch, this night. In the end, he never expected that Cheng Yao Jin, his nephew, Gu Feng, would come out halfway. Gu Feng was chased by Jiang Lanlan and ran around, but he didn't dare to say a word of resistance. Zheng Mu was also taken aback when he found out about this. To be honest, he didn't expect Gu Feng to be so honest. He said it would take half an hour, but the 24 hours were really full. Boss, what should we do now? Is it really just a day and a night? Can you survive without rest? Kai Shinkuan asked worriedly, but Zheng Mu looked at the other person with a strange expression, and then looked at the table, chairs, and small kitchen on his side. The maid served red wine and fruit plate. Is this called non-rest? It can only be said that this little brother still doesn't know much about him as a mechanic. Didn't he think that although he was lying there and sleeping, he still needed to consume energy. Then Zheng Mu can only say, little brother, the traffic situation is getting bigger. Patting the other person on the shoulder, Zheng Mu looked at Gu Feng who was shivering nervously, and stared speechlessly at Jiang Lanlan who was moaning. Okay, no matter how you say it, he is still a male of your family, and he is an S-level professional, so save some face, it's my fault that I didn't make it clear to him. Immediately, Gu Feng was so moved that he was about to cry, seeing that Jiang Lanlan had indeed glared at him, and let him go temporarily. Gu Feng approached carefully. Boss, are you still fighting them? Zheng Mu shook his head, his face was speechless. Did you see me doing something today? I'm just a quiet and handsome man, different from the gang of brazen men with knives and guns. Said, shook his head. Zero nine since the guild challenge has been decided, go prepare something for me. 
Under the curious gazes of the Weiguan campus and a group of students from the colonel's campus who came here to watch the excitement, after a while, Gu Feng and Gu Ming moved a huge sheet that could sleep at least three hours. Bed for four people. Came to the dual field. Hey, hey, isn't it, this guy shouldn't be able to do it. Fuck, this newcomer from the lieutenant campus is very special. Could it be that he plans to sleep here today? Hey, I just checked the information of the mechanic carefully, guess how to find it. As long as the mechanic successfully creates the mechanical creation and the durability of the mechanical creation has not been reset to zero, he will not worry about being unable to act. That is to say, it is different from the summoner we are familiar with. There was a lot of discussion among the people, because of the strength displayed by Zhang Mu and the powerful mechanical creations around him. As a result, more and more people present began to actively study the information of the mechanic. Kai Shinkuan and the others ran over with a few storage backpacks at this time. When it was taken out, it was a brand new set of bedding. Under everyone's gaze, Tifa and the others quickly made the bed, and all the mosquito nets and other things were raised. In front of the big bed, Mary Rose Gold's twin ponytails trembled, stirring the heartstrings of the jealous dogs at the same time, silently installed the projector equipment requested by Zheng Mu in front of her. Fuck. Suddenly, a national curse came, and everyone followed the man's gaze, but they were shocked to find out. Tifa and Mai Shiranui, who originally thought they were just making the bed for Zheng Mu, suddenly got into it from left to right after doing all this. Although both of them were wearing clothes, how many men present could hold back their thoughts? Inside the hazy mosquito net, two beautiful figures lay quietly in it, and then under the gaze of everyone who almost gritted their teeth, Xing Mu got in directly. Damn it! I can't take it anymore. This kid is really fucking annoying. Why don't you just kill me, whoever has a pair of eyes that haven't seen the scene, please dig them out and sell them to me. Is this fellow really so unscrupulous? On the stands, there was a man who was about to grit his teeth, except for the boys with green eyes Ling Bingyong Jiang Ban Ban, they were all shocked by Zheng Mu's operation. It's still out there. If you were in the dormitory, wouldn't it be as simple as letting Tifa and the others warm their beds? However, when Zheng Mu's behavior, even the referee didn't see it. In a burst of light, the projector started working. Under everyone's watchful eyes, on a big screen, the best-selling super-large hot dance collection of the West 8 girls group at the moment began to radiate with passion. Zheng Mu was wearing earphones, Tifa and Mai Shiranui snuggled up on both sides, while he changed into a comfortable position, and his breathing began to relax gradually while watching the hot dance. Look at his comfortable appearance after taking a deep breath and exhaling slowly. A guild leader who had just entered the field almost had his teeth gritted. He glared at the referee beside him. This guy has already reached this point, don't you care about it? The referee was also embarrassed at the moment. But Zheng Mu's current situation has never happened since the establishment of Southwest Military Military University. As long as Zheng Mu did not violate the existing rules, the referee could only cough dryly. Okay, both sides are in place. Zheng Mu, ZZ. The corner of the referee's mouth twitched. With two such beautiful maids, he slept soundly, right? He didn't want to say anything anymore, and directly and decisively announced the start of the challenge. The next moment, the moment the referee just exited. Black Claw suddenly roared. In the dark night, not only him, but all liquors got a certain blessing, and there was no order intervention from Zheng Mu. Black Claw and the others immediately exploded with even more terrifying fighting power than before. Roar! A dark cave suddenly appeared under his feet, and the next moment, the sharp claws of the Black Claws chopped the armor of the president of the warrior class to pieces. The scene is quite miserable and full of irony. On the one hand, there was a difficult resistance, and then a dozen liquors rummaged and gnawed, smashing back and forth like meat hammers, and finally was forced to use a defensive talisman to save a life in an emergency. On one side is a hot video of twisting waist and hips playing in front of him, and next to him are two hot maids, the newcomer Xing Mu who is sleeping soundly. If not everyone present knew the real situation, I'm afraid they would never have imagined that the person who was sleeping soundly behind the hazy mosquito net. 
He was just a newcomer who had just entered Southwest Military Attaché University for less than a month. There was something wrong with the atmosphere of the dual field at night. It can almost be described as shoulder to shoulder on the viewing platform. Some people who saw the absurd duel here called their friends one after another, and naturally more and more people came here to watch the excitement. In the duel arena, an unknown amount of time has passed since Cheng Mu fell asleep. Anyway, at this moment in the dual field, the guild president of the lieutenant campus has already changed three or four. Each of these guys came up, not because they were beaten back again and again by the intensive firepower of the T-800, but after several attempts to break through the defense failed, they were ravaged by Optimus Prime and Heiba. Reluctantly, he activated the defensive talisman on his body, taking advantage of the gap that could block it for a moment, he announced his surrender. It was directly killed by Black Claw and the others quickly and ruthlessly. Among these people, Zheng Mu has given them the information of those who can be killed and those who cannot be killed. In the face of highly intelligent mechanical creations, this judgment is nothing at all. There was a gentle breeze at night, and these people in the officer's campus watched the excitement without thinking it was a big deal, and they all smiled at each other and commented on those guild leaders who were in a panic and almost died. However, those guilds who had no choice but to pay 100 00 defeat contribution points were in mourning. Do not know who. When I saw another guild leader who was considered a strong individual in the personal strength of the Weiguan campus. It was also an accident, one arm was directly cut off by the Black Claw, Yuan Haozhua chose to surrender and admit defeat. It was sobbing and crying directly. Woo woo woo. Those who have already got the ending have tears in their pale eyes, and those who have not yet stepped onto the execution ground have scarlet eyes and trembling legs. President Wang, I wonder if you have the confidence to kill Zheng Mu on this duel. Among the several guilds in the lieutenant campus, the leaders of the top guilds approached Wang Hai and asked this question straightforwardly. We made a total calculation just now. With our strength, we can guarantee that we will admit defeat before being killed by Zheng Mu's mechanical creation, and we can't do it if we want to defeat him. If you are sure, each of us is willing to contribute 500 00 contribution points, and you go up and kill Zheng Mu. The president who spoke was dressed in an archer style professional attire, but at this moment, one of his arms was still stretched with blood stained gauze. The arm was cut off by a liquor just now if it weren't for the fact that there happened to be a bottle of potion that could connect the severed limbs. His archer profession is simply abolished. However, Wang Hai frowned slightly when he saw the obvious hatred on the other party's face. Nine guilds, each with 500 00 contribution points. And if I win the battle with Xing Mu, then the opponent's 10 million contribution points will fall into my hand sooner or later. Wrong. The fiery color in Wang Hai's eyes gradually ignited. Zheng Mu, from 8 o'clock in the morning to the early morning of the next day, has won challenges from 41 guilds. As a result, the other party will get 41 million contribution points. Wang Hai stood up slowly, looking at the sleeping figure lying behind the mosquito net in the distance. Grit your teeth. Once you do the other party, you will get 550W contribution points. Even if he knew that the opponent was behind the high-level school, he was the one who killed the opponent through a normal duel, at worst, all these contribution points would be consumed by his strong promotion 10 Percy. Then just quit school and left. The abacus was crackling in Wang Hai's mind. Thinking of a certain killer weapon that he had treasured all along, Wang Hai finally nodded coldly and stared at the few people. Pay the bill first. On the opposite side, the Wheel of Truth Guild, even though it was early in the morning, none of the two zero zero guild members chose to leave, but they were already cuddling together, and their eyelids were starting to fight. This guy Zheng Mu is really not a thing. Jiang Lanlan murmured, this was the first time she said something bad about Zheng Mu. Looking at the two figures clinging to Zheng Mu's left and right behind the mosquito net, he could not help but glance at Ling Binyue, who also had an ugly face. But it suddenly moved over. I suddenly felt that the relationship between us, or Su Ying, should change. Seeing Ling Bingyue's puzzled and surprised eyes, Jiang Lanlan pointed to the mosquito net not far away. You said, the earlier Zheng Mu's mechanical creations become more realistic and more like real people, 
will one day be able to have the same sense of reality as ours. When Leng Binyue heard this, the one she had seen in Zheng Mu's dormitory before could not help appearing in her mind. Zheng Mu introduced a woman named Mirage. Thinking carefully, the opponent should be a mechanical creature, but it is obviously more intelligent than Tifa, and it is also more difficult to distinguish. Thinking of this, Leng Binyue couldn't help but gasp. Looking at Jiang Lanlin's questioning gaze, she finally nodded slowly. It is indeed the first thing to deal with right now. At the same time, after finishing the family affairs 110, he Shang Yun seemed to be reborn. The smile on his face was like a holy lotus blooming on the snow mountain, and he hurried back to the campus. When he found out that Jing Mu was still fighting in the dual field at this moment, he was shocked, took out his mobile phone, and discovered the recent major event in Saizhong. Running wildly all the way, when she came to the dual field and looked at the listless crowd on her side of the stand, her pretty face turned pale, thinking that something happened to Zheng Mu. But he heard a sudden violent beating from the field, accompanied by a man's mournful wail. Surrender. I surrender. Ah, my eyes. Turning his head to look, he was directly stunned by the scene in front of him. The screaming man should have been the focus at the moment, however, He Shang Yun's gaze was just staring blankly at the side of the dual arena, the huge bed with a mosquito net and the projection screen that is playing the dance of the West Eight Nations Girls Group. For some reason, this familiar absurd operation made her look at the figure in the mosquito net. Although it was a bit vague, the one in the middle was obviously Zheng Mu who wanted to thank her very much. The holy lotus smile on He Shang Yun's face gradually disappeared. Finally, two words were squeezed out between the teeth. Scumbag. Also confused by Zheng Mu's manipulation, there were He Guang and Qin Ji who were on the high platform at the moment. They are not people who have nothing to do, but today they are standing here just like this. Watch Zheng Mu's mechanical creations kill all directions. Watching Zheng Mu himself sound asleep. He Guang felt some pain and patted his forehead. If I had met such an opponent and been so humiliated by the opponent back in my day, I'm afraid I would even have the intention of committing suicide. Qin Ji nodded helplessly. The next day. When Zheng Mu woke up slowly, he was surprised to find that the expected battle in the scene did not appear at this moment. On the contrary, there were twice as many people in the stands as before he went to bed. Damn it, wake up, Zheng Mu looks like this, why is he so disgusting when he has such a good image? Hey, don't talk about it. I heard that several guild leaders who were defeated by his mechanical creation last night couldn't bear the pressure and announced the disbandment of the guild. I heard that even they themselves have the idea of dropping out of school. It's too shocking. I'm a newcomer. If I lose to him after a fierce battle, I can comfort myself by saying that the other party is a genius. Zheng Mu. Either surprise, anger, or admiration focused on Zheng Mu. The referee walked over quickly. Student Jing Mu, just now, the 128 guilds challenged by your guild, except for the first place Sea Dragon Guild, the remaining guilds that have not yet competed have all surrendered in advance. Jing Mu was stunned. Isn't this too fast? That's throwing in the towel. Isn't that a little too hasty? They are seniors. Chapter 86 Hearing Xing Mu's words, even though he is a referee in the same camp as Xing Mu. I don't know what to say at this moment. So you also know that these people are your seniors. Others are racking their brains to break through the defense of your mechanical creations, unleashing their skills crazily. When fighting seriously, you are served by beautiful women, drinking and eating food, just like a patron who patronizes business in a certain place. They are of such high levels and have been practicing in the academy and in the wild for so many years. In front of you, they can only hope to hold on for a few more minutes without losing too much face. You do not think that these people are seniors and relax. The referee shook his head. Wang Hai, the president of the Sea Dragon Guild, once again wanted to reschedule the battle time with you. He set the time for three days. We need to ask for your opinion. This situation would naturally not have been allowed in the past. However, the actual situation here today is unprecedented in Southwest Military Attaché University, so Qin Ji directly agreed to deal with special matters. 
Hearing this, Zheng Mu thought for a moment and then simply nodded. It was just a two-day delay, but Zheng didn't care much about it. Now he has three Red Warrior level mechanical creations under his command, Liquor Black Claw, Transformers Base, and the latest, which is also closely related to combat power and luck, Magic War Puppet Robot Mira J. And his HP and MP are directly tied to the durability of the mechanical creation. It can almost be said that his HP has reached a terrifying nearly 30W. It is no exaggeration to say that even if Wang Hai had some extraordinary means, he Zheng Mu stood there motionless and let the other party attack him. It's not certain that this guy can cause much harm to himself. After seeing Zheng Mu agree to defer the challenge, Wang Hai, who was standing in the stands, breathed a sigh of relief. After nodding to Zheng Mu, he headed outside the duel venue. Seeing the other person's back hurriedly leaving, the corners of Zheng Mu's 680 mouth couldn't help but curl up. To be honest, the other party dared to accept this challenge even after he showed off his power. Zheng Mu was really curious about what Wang Hai could do. At this moment, there was a burst of footsteps behind him. Then the excited shouts from Kai Xinkuan and others came. Boss, you've got a fortress. As soon as this guy entered school, he immediately climbed to the top and became the strongest person in Weiguan campus. Ha ha ha, boss, didn't you see the expressions of those guild presidents when they left, ha ha ha, as if their biological fathers were dead. More than that, boss, let me tell you, I just heard from the guild management office that more than 20 guilds have announced their dissolution. If you wait any longer, I guess they won't be able to hold on. Listening to the excited discussions of the people gathered around him, Zheng just smiled calmly. He looked to the side behind him. When I first woke up in the morning, the place where the challenger weapons and equipment were originally stacked was now piled up into a small mountain. In addition, weapons such as swords, guns, swords and halberds, staffs and firearms are evenly arranged. Most of them were stained with blood. At the end of the day, there were 30 or 40 challengers who died in Zheng Mu's hands, and naturally there were equipment for 30 or 40 people here. As guild leaders, their equipment is basically all purple. It's just that the level of the equipment is different depending on the individual's wealth. Just when everyone was cheering, a slightly awkward voice came. Um, classmate Zheng Mu, congratulations. Zheng Mu turned around when he heard the voice, only to see He Shang Yun standing behind him nervously. The most important thing was that today's opponent was not wearing a lieutenant's uniform, but a purple dress. Zheng Mu's familiar ponytail also disappeared, and her waist-length hair was draped behind her back. Zheng Mu looked at that appearance directly. Holy shit! Black, long and straight. Zheng Mu admitted that his heart needed to be broken again, otherwise it would not be enough. Leng Binyue and Jiang Lanlan, who were about to step forward to speak, also narrowed their eyes slightly after seeing He Shang Yun like this. Looking at each other, they both saw the vigilance and suspicion in each other's eyes. Is uncle's condition getting better? That thing should be working, right? He Shang Yun's pretty face had a smile, but her eyes were slightly red, and she nodded lightly. My father has woken up. He asked me to come over to thank you. In addition, he hopes to invite you to my home. Wow even. As soon as these words came out, Kai Shinkuan and others around him immediately started to boo. Looking at He Shang Yun who blushed with embarrassment, Zheng Mu also stared at them speechlessly. I know you like to be my wingman, but can you take a look at the scene? After He Shang Yun said these words, Zheng Mu could clearly feel the chill coming from his side. Zheng Mu could imagine it without even looking. Who else could this familiar aura be besides Ling Bingyue, the female devil of the cold wind? After coughing dryly, Zheng Mu waved his hands hurriedly. Ahem, thank you is not necessary, as long as you don't hate me any more for what happened before. At this moment, He Shang Yun's cheeks suddenly flew away. His body trembled slightly, as if he thought of some extraordinary scene. Fortunately, she could also feel the scrutinizing gazes of Ling Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan, and hurriedly took out the things her father had given her during her trip. This is the trophy my father got from the monster before he was injured. It is definitely not as good as what you gave me, but... After He Shang Yun put something into Zheng Mu's hand, he glanced at Ling Bingyue and whispered. I will repay you. 
After saying that, He Shan Yun quickly squeezed out of the crowd and ran towards the outside of the dual venue like a frightened deer. Zheng Mu's mouth was slightly uncontrollable. Some people must be feeling secretly happy at this moment. Are they going to brag about their damn charm? A faint voice came, and Zheng Mu's expression suddenly froze. I was shocked, could Leng Bingyue, an A-level howling wind swordsman, have mind-reading skills? I'm not, I didn't, don't talk nonsense. Not only in the Weiguan campus, but also in the school officer campus and even the higher general officer campus, there are vague legends about him. Unbeknownst to Zheng Mu, Zheng Mu's unbelievable and even absurd battle video was pinned to the top of the forum on the mobile phone of students at Southwest Military Attaché University. Damn it, crazy, crazy, this newcomer is too fierce, isn't he? Damn, isn't this guy even tired? Upstairs, if it were you hugging each other, others madly outputting their skills, and you sitting there eating meat and drinking wine, would you be tired? I checked it out and suddenly discovered that, in fact, the profession of mechanic, if its own shortcomings are solved, is quite powerful, at least it is a level 5 profession. Hey, a grown-up mechanic is a human shield warrior with countless summoned beasts. Let me see how many people don't know that mechanical creations are immortal and mechanics will never die. Holy crap, guess what I found. Thirteen more guilds came to the guild management office, all of them applying for dissolution. This newcomer, who had only been in school for a few days, directly forced half of the guilds in Weiguan campus to dissolve. When I saw these messages you sent, I suddenly had a bad feeling is this newcomer going to be promoted to the official campus of our school soon? Will he also compete with us by then? Let's ignore for the moment how the Weiguan campus guild was wailing and there was feathers all over the place. At this moment, Zheng Mu, who has nearly 130 million contribution points, is standing in front of a building on the Weiguan campus. I'm talking about a permanent location. Why rent it? This building will belong to our Wheel of Truth Guild from now on. Please set a price. Zheng Mu was full of pride at the moment. He looked at the embarrassed guild management office staff in front of him and said calmly. Well, President Zheng, the monthly rent of this building is 1, 4 million contribution points. As for the permanent residence, this there is no precedent for this in our campus. Zheng Mu waved his hand. Do you have any precedent for one person stirring up trouble in all the guilds? Communicate with the people above you and tell them this is my hard-earned money. Be quick. When the matter was reported to Qin Ji, the latter smiled bitterly and shook his head. Although this matter had never happened before, Qin Ji chose to approve it without hesitation considering Zheng Mu's potential and Mr. Li's original evaluation of Zheng Mu. Isn't it just a building? You can tie this kid to the car of Southwest Military Attaché University, what's the point of Raidonglu? On the other side, after the two 0000 contribution points were spent, Zheng Mu and the others, who had just established the Wheel of Truth Guild a few days ago, had a permanent building directly in the center of the Weiguan campus of Southwest Military Attaché University. If it were an ordinary building, the actual value of the contribution points would not be worth even 1 million, let alone 20 million. But these buildings at Southwest Military Attaché University are not ordinary. Not only does the interior have luxurious and high-end decoration, but it also has many functions that Zheng Mu and the others had never thought of before. Simulation training grounds, large space warehouses, and special places for all types of life occupations, such as pharmacy laboratories, forging rooms, and other facilities are all available. What made Jing Mu scream even more was that the building actually had a teleportation array that could lead directly to the outside. There is no need to go to the teleportation square in the center of the campus. From now on, Jing Mu and the others only need to pass through the teleportation array in the building to go to the wild to fight monsters and complete the mission. Boss, boss, isn't this too extravagant? Oh my god, just maintaining the operation of these facilities this month will cost a lot of contribution points. San Luo looked shocked. An independent teleportation array, let alone it. Even though his family conditions are not bad, he is still considered a powerful person in the local area. But I have never heard of a teleportation array being placed in a building. In the future, with the end of the second freshman assessment, 
a large number of newcomers will inevitably flow into Southwest Military Attaché University. Then the teleportation array in the square will definitely be under a lot of pressure. However, they don't have to fight with those people at all. Zheng Mu didn't feel anything about this. He was from the Dragon Kingdom and was deeply bound to Southwest Military Attaché University. In his opinion, there was nothing to conflict with. After directly exchanging for such a building, Zheng Mu finally moved out of that small single dormitory. On the 33rd floor of the building, in front of the huge floor-to-ceiling windows, Zheng Mu could see the blue sea outside Chengdu at a glance, and could vaguely see the flying cloud boats coming and going above the sea. From time to time, some monster heads poke out and attack from the sea. Ocean now. Blue Star's most terrifying wild copy. Even the SS-level protector gods of various countries dare not cross the sea rashly. Behind him, Tifa and others have already started to clean up Zheng Mu's residence. From now on, the entire floor here will be Zheng Mu's alone. Just leave the maids like Tifa to take care of life matters. Zheng Mu's eyes were now looking at the T-800 in front of him that he had just synthesized. The blue elite-level mechanical creations are now somewhat unable to cope with some of the opponents they face today. For example, when we were at Aspia Cult Stronghold, Zheng Mu had more than a dozen T-800s under his command, and they were almost knocked out of durability on the spot. Whether it's defense or its own attack power. In addition to being able to suppress the opponent with firepower while occupying a numerical advantage. It can basically be said that he has fallen out of the ranks of the backbone of mechanical creations under Zheng Mu. Putting a hand on the opponent's shoulder, Mu looked worried. Use the mechanics only level skill on picture transformation, obtained from the Aspia cult stronghold. Along with a burst of distorted light, the T-800's body was covered. After a few breaths, there was a click. The light dissipated, but the T-800 in front of him had changed its appearance. A man with a silver-white body, no facial features, and looks like a mannequin in a clothing store. Humanoid nanobody module, purple rare-grade mechanical component The machine is the work of Zheng Mu, an advanced carrying module for humanoid mechanical creations. It can be used as the main module of humanoid mechanical creations with higher performance. It can carry and run more high-grade mechanical components. Zheng Mu's eyes suddenly lit up. After returning from the secret realm, this is not the first time that I have used unpictured transformation. This skill can directly upgrade mechanical creations, or transform them into higher level mechanical components. However, I have used it more than a dozen times. More than a dozen T-800s were scrapped by themselves. Now it's finally a success. When Zheng Mu saw the information about the mechanical components in front of him, his eyes lit up. Although it was not directly upgraded to a high-level complete mechanical creation, it was a purple rare-level mechanical component. It's better to replace it than scrap it. Looking at the mechanical components in front of him, Zheng Mu frowned and thought for a moment. Suddenly, I took out a few things from my storage backpack. The red hero-level materials insect mother's origin capsule, and imperial vein insect eggs, were originally obtained from the Jin Huang insect mother. Easy to use and more advanced zero, zero transfer gold hand. The light wrapped the material, and Zheng Mu also became nervous. The red brave level material insect mother's origin capsule, was successfully transformed, and the red brave level mechanical component core component, regeneration, was obtained. The red brave level material imperial vein egg, was successfully transformed, and the red brave level mechanical component restricted component highest order was obtained. After being drained of a certain amount of durability by the windbreaker on his body, he turned to gold twice in succession and completed it in the blink of an eye. TSK, what is all this and what? Zheng Mu murmured, without the system providing new drawings, he could only hope that, like the original Transformers base, the existing drawings would be. On the basis. Zheng Mu was thinking while looking through his storage backpack to see if there was anything that could be transformed. Soon, he took out the Red Warrior level material Blood of the Evil God, obtained from the Secret Realm Aspia Cult Stronghold. He took out the two Red Jade Stones that He Shang Yun gave him as a thank you gift from his father. Evil Eye Jade, Purple Rare Material, which contains all the core power of the Evil Eye Demon Clan. 
It is used to make spiritual defense equipment, forge staffs, and create spiritual power enhancement. Important Materials for Quasi-Pharmaceuticals When he saw the information about the two ordinary red jade stones in his hand, Xingmu looked startled. Then, as if he thought of something, his eyes couldn't help but glance at the other mechanical components in front of him. Fuck, maybe it's really possible. Unable to wait, Zhengmu once again activated the effect of his windbreaker on the spot. As the huge base vehicle parked on a large square somewhere in Southwest Military Attaché University, electric sparks flickered. The cooldown time of Transfer Gold Hand LV-1 has ended again. The purple rare material Evil Eye Jade was successfully transformed, and the purple rare mechanical component Spiritual Radio Frequency Core Sharingan was obtained. Chapter 87 Fuck! It's done! On the floor, Mira Jane, who was cleaning up Jing Mu's house with Tifa and the others, looked at Jing Mu who was shouting and jumping excitedly. Pulling her pink cheeks, she couldn't help but smile, frowning, and murmuring softly. President, sometimes you really look like a cute little boy. Sharingan. Jing Mu didn't expect that Shang Yun would give him such a surprise. As this component was created by him, a brand new blueprint was quickly formed in his mind. He looked at some of the materials on hand and already knew what kind of mechanical creation he wanted to make. After waiting for the durability of the mechanical creation under his command to be almost restored, he also completed the transformation of the remaining evil eye jade. Looking at the two thumb-sized, scarlet body surface, there are three black Magatama mechanical devices. In Zheng Mu's eyes, all the other party's information appeared. Psychic Radio Frequency Core, Sharingan, comma, Purple Rare Grade Mechanical Component The machine is the work of Zheng Mu, a machine that can not only greatly resist psychic wave attacks, but also be able to drive the generation of psychic waves to counterattack the target. The component has good combat analysis and data processing functions. There was a lot of words, and the description was clearly what Zheng Mu thought the three Magatama Sharingan should look like. The materials required for the main functions are basically almost there, and now there is only the last core that needs to be prepared. Zheng Mu murmured, immediately stood up and headed towards the resource management office. I have tens of millions of contribution points on hand. This time I can just take advantage of this opportunity to improve myself and deal with some issues for the future guild. Now, when Zheng Mu was walking on the road of Weiguan campus again, everyone who saw him along the way changed their expressions and hurriedly stepped aside. It's as if Zheng Mu is some kind of scourge. Obviously, Zheng Mu's strong behavior as a newcomer has turned his reputation into a heinous villain who does not respect his seniors under the secret propaganda of the major guilds in Weiguan campus. Resource Management Office Hello, I need something on this list. When the staff saw the nearly one meter long list prepared by Zheng Mu in advance, they were stunned. Ten, zero zero pieces of white ordinary level monster brain materials. A blue elite level humanoid monster skeleton. These are all low level things. For the resource management office of Southwest Military Attaché University, they are not a big deal. But when she saw the content at the end of the list, she was not calm at all. Secret Potion Primary Blood Volume Restoration Potion Secret Potion, Intermediate Blood Volume Restoration Potion Secret Potion Advanced Blood Volume Restoration Potion Secret Potion Recipe Toxin Removing Potion Secret Potion Recipe Forging Blueprint Green Excellent Level Jungle Orcs Blessing Set Forging Blueprint Blue Elite Elite Cavalry Regiment Set Forging Blueprint Purple Rare Level Set in the future, what other talisman making skill books will there be? Here, this classmate, these things require life type occupations to use and learn. If they are not corresponding to life type occupations, whether it is the professional mentor's experience you want later, or these drawing skills you can't learn from books. Zheng Mu nodded directly, indicating that he understood directly. In addition to the things required here and the materials for making the things on the drawings, you also prepare a hundred copies for me. Hearing this, seeing Zheng Mu's serious face, the staff just thought that Zheng Mu was exchanging money for someone else. However, these blueprint skill books exchanged are all not very advanced skill books. Logically speaking, 
these things can be unlocked automatically as long as they are life-related occupations. No one will buy these life occupation skill books dropped from monsters. After spending a full 3 million contribution points, Jing Mu returned to his residence directly. With a wave of his hand, he took out 10,000 pieces of monster brain materials from his storage backpack. Before the bloody smell had time to dissipate, an invisible stance appeared in his hand. One after another, in a strange light, they turned into simple motherboard chips. Low level intelligent core, White ordinary level mechanical components worked by Mechanic Xingmu, which can be installed in mechanical objects and process some simple commands and information. Under the influence of the skill nano mechanical wave, ten times in a row, Xingmu looked at the intelligent core of the place, finally took a deep breath, and started his huge project. Xingmu has never used the skill smart component upgrade. Now, in order to have a higher success rate in making mechanical creations without completely matching the drawings, he had to start from scratch. Through this skill, he can step by step create an intelligent core that completely matches his final mechanical creation. This process is similar to pinching faces in previous games. However, Zheng Mu was able to use this skill to upgrade each low level intelligent core into a high level core that was increasingly just the intelligent thinking of the mechanical creation in his heart. You cast intelligent component upgrade on the white normal level low level intelligent core, and you obtain the green excellent level simple battlefield intelligent core. You used intelligent component upgrade on the green excellent simple battlefield intelligent core, and you obtained the blue elite intelligent soldier core component. You used Smart Component Upgrade, on the Blue Elite Intelligent Soldier Core Component. The target upgrade failed and the target was damaged. Crack. Looking at the motherboard core in his hand as the light dissipated, and suddenly there was a burning smell, Jing Mu didn't have much reaction to it. Throw it aside and pick up a white ordinary level low level intelligent core, again. Outside World. AT-800, Liquor, and Transformers Base, that were placed in the Wheel of Truth Guild building by Zheng Mu, as well as the Transformers base, staying in the open space outside, were accompanied by Zheng Mu's crazy use of them. The Windbreaker equipment refreshes the cooldown time of skills. The electric sparks kept tingling. However, due to its own certain durability recovery ability, Zheng Mu consumes a lot of durability. But it is basically the same as the total durability recovery of these mechanical creations. Among the Wheel of Truth Guild. Some members who happened to have nothing to do today and didn't go out to fight monsters were all shocked and they saw this scene. If Sheng Mu hadn't called Kai Shinkuan and others in advance to inform them of what might happen. These guys probably didn't think something happened to them. Sheng Mu spends the entire day sitting in the shelter. And the mechanical creations under his command that he selected as the priority blood bank were also crackling with electric light and sparks all day long. Nima, do you want to do this? In the room, Zheng Mu was sitting on the sofa. On the table in front of you are three purple rare level intelligent core components. However, even the purple rare level smart components are only available for this day. After upgrading all the intelligent cores, these three were not the only ones that succeeded in the end. However, the remaining purple rare level components were all scrapped when Zheng Mu upgraded to the red brave level. This directly made Zheng Mu feel less confident. TNND, I can't bear to let my child catch the wolf. Anyway, all I lost was some contribution points and time. Zheng Mu took a deep breath and sighed. As the skill smart component upgrade was used again, a burning sensation came along with the familiar burnt smell. I don't believe it. Zheng Mu picked up a piece of advanced intelligent core, again. Upgrade. Zheng Mu was confused. Was his luck today so bad? Although he was more or less mentally prepared, when the facts were revealed in front of him, he was still shocked by the difficulty of upgrading the purple rare level components to the red brave level. It's the last piece. If it doesn't work, I can only go to the resource management center again. With a sigh, he solemnly picked up the last piece advanced intelligent core factory. If it weren't for this artifact that could refresh the skill's cooldown time, Jing Mu would have upgraded 10 white common level smart components step by step to this point. I don't know what year of the monkey and horse it will be. 
he was seriously thinking about the characteristics of the mechanical creation he wanted. This character template was already quite mature and perfect in Jing Mu's mind. As the skill is cast again, the twisted purple light circulated, and in the blink of an eye, rows of rolling red light bloomed at the moment Jing Mu closed his eyes. You cast Intelligent Component Upgrade, on the Purple Rare Grade Advanced Intelligent Core, and you obtain the Red Brave Grade Advanced Intelligent Component Achiha Musen. Fuck. The moment the voice in his mind rang, Zheng Mu saw the bright red light and scarlet triangular crystal in his hand. The whole person was so excited that he picked up Mira Jane who was standing beside him. The breath that hit her face made Mirage's pretty face turn red. She already had a complete mind. In addition to being absolutely loyal to Zheng Mu's supreme command in her heart, she was also fully equipped with natural female emotions such as shyness. The president is really cunning. As expected, Miss Binyue is right. I am really very dangerous. Listening to Mira Jane's slightly playful words, Zheng Mu burst out laughing. How can you use words like dangerous to talk about your president? Binyue just can't eat grapes and say sour grapes, ha ha ha. Mira Jane was speechless, Mu sure really didn't hide his scumbag nature. Holding the soft and delicate body in his arms, Zheng Mu looked at the advanced intelligent component Achiha Immortal, in his hand, his eyes full of excitement. Mira Jane, who was held in Zheng Mu's arms, seemed to sense something. A serious look gradually appeared on the crimson face. President, you have really created an incredible companion it's really terrifying. Even Mira Jane called him terrifying, but Zheng was not surprised by this. In a sense, he is like the creator, creating a new soul. Achiha no misfortune. Zheng Mu combines characters from two previous animations to create the soul of an advanced mechanical creation. The combination of Achiha Madara, Shura of the Ninja World, and Muzan, the ancestor of ghosts. Named Achiha Wumis by Zheng Mu. Letting go of Mira Jane in his arms, Zheng Mu put aside this advanced smart component with almost no trace of mechanical components. Picked up another thing on the table. Blood of the Evil God, red hero level material, the blood of the evil god Aspia, has extremely strong evil power and contains the power of a curse that ordinary people cannot bear. Not recommended for use. What looked like an urn had a dark red unknown talisman on it. Just by looking at it, you can feel a chilling ominousness. However, when Zheng Mu saw this thing now, he felt like he had seen a huge treasure. Rubbing his hands, he secretly thought that whether he could really achieve the Uchiha no misfortune would depend on whether the blood of the evil god was powerful enough. Thinking about it, the skill turned golden hand, was activated instantly. The red brave level material blood of the evil god, was successfully transformed and the red brave level mechanical component matrix system breath of destruction, was obtained. Matrix system breath of destruction, red brave level mechanical components the machine is the work of Zheng Mu. The internal blockade has extremely dangerous and unknown power, which can greatly drive the machine. Creation, while forming a strong combat power, there is a certain chance that the attack target will be infected with the breath of ruin and enter a random debuff state for a long time. Hiss. Done. When Zheng Mu saw the information about the mechanical components transformed by the blood of the evil god, he clenched his fists in excitement. I simply don't want to delay it for even a second. Just take out all the materials you have prepared. The system is then mobilized immediately. The original drawing of Mira Jane was chosen as the basis. Next moment. It does not match the established drawings, and the assembly verification is being reset. Assembling according to unknown path, feasibility is 85%, please note the risk of damage. Seeing that the feasibility was slightly lower than when he first assembled the base vehicle, Zheng Mu gritted his teeth and chose to continue after a little thought. With a burst of continuously rotating luminous air, everything in front of him was sucked into it. The system's voices began to sound in Zheng Mu's mind one after another. Humanoid nanobody module main body, loading completed. Psychic RF core Sharingan left eye, loading completed. Psychic radio frequency core Sharingan right eye. Advanced intelligent core Uchiha Musen, loading completed. Restricted component highest order, loading completed, Qian Ma Zhao. 
Matrix System Breath of Ruin, loading completed. As the light disappeared after a burst of strong energy subsided, a man with a cold face appeared in front of Xin Mu, as if he was releasing an ominous aura towards the surroundings at any time. Black-haired man. Zheng Mu looked at the other party's dark eyes, and seemed to feel Zheng Mu's curiosity. Wow! An invisible spiritual force field instantly centered on the man and spread to the surroundings. Mira Jane, who had been beside Zheng Mu, changed her expression, and without any hesitation, she instantly activated the devil's heart, in her body and exploded with surging magic power within a millisecond. The first is to enter the state of receiving the soul of Satan. Standing in front of Zheng Mu, he looked warily at the stranger in front of him, but he was a companion created by the master. You guy, how dare you act so arrogantly in front of the master? Seeing Mira Jane ready to take action, Zheng Mu was shocked and hurriedly stopped her. Stop! The sharp devil's claw suddenly stopped less than three inches in front of the man. Uchi Hamume, who had just been created by Zheng Mu, looked indifferent and had no intention of avoiding it at all while Zheng Mu looked at the opponent's pupils with a fiery face. Mirage, relax, he is just showing me his abilities according to my will. Mira Jane did not hesitate at all to Zheng Mu's order. She gave Uchiha Musen a warning look and then faded away from her current transformation state. Zheng Mu looked at Uchiha Musen who was standing in front of him at this moment. Although he was still cold, his expression was obviously humble. Nodding with satisfaction. With this attribute, there is no doubt that Uchiha Musen at this moment is more than a little bit stronger than Mira Jane, the three-second true demon next to him. After thinking about it, a dark red samurai sword suddenly appeared in Jing Mu's hand. As soon as it appeared, a bloody and putrid smell filled the air. It is the red hero level weapon, the cursed sword, and the soul of Budu. Chapter 88 Jing Mu stayed in the residence alone for two days without seeing anyone. Such a move immediately reminded Leng Binyue and others of the mechanical maids such as Tifa who were extremely beautiful around Zheng Mu and would definitely satisfy any of his demands. One after another finally couldn't sit still. Wheel of Truth Guild Headquarters Kai Shinkuan suddenly felt bad when he saw Leng Binyue, Jiang Lan Lan, and He Shang Yun, who were mixed together for some reason, walking upstairs with cold expressions on their faces. He quickly took out his cell phone. Boss, it's not good. Leng Binyue has led people to your top floor. Be prepared to deal with it. With the ding of the elevator, Leng Binyue and the others appeared on the top floor. As soon as the elevator door opened, the three of them were completely shocked and speechless by the scene in front of them. Looking around, before entering Zheng Mu's residence, the corridors and doorways were filled with clothes scattered all over the floor. Skirts, pants, leather jackets, and even underwear that makes one tremble all over. Almost instantly, the three of them had imagined a large number of extremely absurd scenes. Leng Binyue's anger, which had been suppressed along the way, finally completely exploded in an instant. Even though I know Zheng Mu is the kind of scumbag who never refuses or takes the initiative. But after all, they had never seen the ridiculous things between him and those beautiful mechanical maids, so the three of them silently acted like ostriches, trying to keep Zheng Mu by their side under the influence of time. However, everything now has completely shattered their last illusion. Zheng Mu! You bastard! Leng Binyue spoke with an unprecedented angry tone, the wind was blowing at her feet, and she did not pull out the sword at her waist. This was the last sanity she left to herself. With a crash, the door in front of him was pushed open suddenly. The next moment, before she could loudly accuse the ridiculous scene that should appear in front of her, she accidentally kicked something under her feet. Bang bang! Bang bang! Amidst the sounds of a series of glass shattering, Jiang Lan Lan and He Shang Yun, who ran after them, also stayed on the spot after seeing the scene in the room. The ridiculous scene between Zheng Mu and the maids did not appear. At this moment, everyone was neatly dressed and looking at a few people with surprised and complicated expressions. However, these are not the main points. As far as you can see in Zheng Mu's huge top floor residence, things are piled up everywhere. Bottles of glass liquids of different shapes and colors on the floor are placed in separate areas, densely packed without leaving any gaps. 
In a room that should have been used as a study, although you couldn't see what it looked like inside, there was a large pile of neat 217 cloths dropped high on the floor at the open doorway. Then in the kitchen area, there was a faint smell of blood mixed with some kind of elegant ink fragrance, and palm-sized papers were stacked on the kitchen table and on the floor. Just when Leng Bingyue and others' brains were shut down and they didn't understand everything at all, Jing Mu's slightly cold voice came to the ears of the three women. Are you arresting some criminal? A simple question made Leng Bingyue and the others tremble. The three of them looked at each other, and Zheng Mu's half-smiling gaze made them completely lose their ability to think. Obviously, Zheng Mu stayed at the residence for two days and there was no news at all. It was not that he was doing something shameful. Suddenly, He Xiang seemed to have discovered something. Suddenly Jian took a breath of cold air and pointed at the potion bottles on the ground in shock, as well as the potions that had been assembled. These are health recovery potions. And these empty bottles, you, Xing Mu, aren't you a mechanic? How can you still make potions? He Shang Yun's question finally made Ling Bingyue and the others discover that the things placed everywhere were actually props or materials with properties. Elementary Blood Volume Recovery Potion, a white ordinary level consumable work by pharmacist to know. One, which can restore a small amount of the user's lost blood volume. The recovery speed is slow, and there are no conditions for use. Intermediate Level Blood Volume Recovery Potion, a white ordinary level consumable product worked by pharmacist to know. 3. Which can restore part of the user's lost blood volume. The recovery speed is average, and there are no conditions for use. Advanced Blood Volume Black Linen, white ordinary grade material, the most common cloth armor equipment manufacturing material, can be used to make low-level cloth armor equipment. Yellow Paper White ordinary grade material, the most common basic material for making talismans. As soon as their eyes turned, the three people's eyes were directed towards the dozen or so figures present except for them and Zheng Mu. These people were all dressed as maids, except for Tifa, who they knew. The rest are obviously Zheng Mu's latest mechanical maids. However, if it were in the past, when they saw so many new beautiful maids around Zheng Mu, Leng Bingyue and the others would definitely explode. But at this moment, the master is watching the actions of these maids in front of him with dull eyes. Put some white common grade very common low grade herbs together with an empty glass bottle. As he pressed with his hands, in a burst of light, a large bottle of standard primary blood volume recovery potion appeared in front of him. This, this is a pharmacist. No, this. Jiang Lanlan comes from a famous family and dare not say that she is well informed, but she definitely knows more and higher level rumors than others. However, things like this are about mechanical creations making potions. She was truly unheard of. At the same time, in the kitchen area, two beautiful maids held up brushes stained with the blood and ink of special monsters and waved them on the talisman paper to write down. The next moment, there was a burst of light. Although there was still a distance, the three of them could not doubt the energy fluctuations emitted by the low-level talisman. Suddenly, He Shan Yun seemed to have thought of something, and hurriedly took a step back and picked up a slightly ordinary long skirt from the door. Ordinary slub skirt, white ordinary level equipment work of Taylor No. 2, long skirt made of black linen and low-level textile technology, HP 100, MP 150. Hiss. The bright words tailors work no. Two made people have no choice but to believe no matter how unbelievable the picture was. Zheng, Zheng Mu, you can actually make your mechanical creations do the things of life professionals. Jiang Lanlan asked excitedly and shockedly but the expression on her face was slowly hurt. For no other reason, Zheng Mu was standing behind a desk at this moment, with his arms folded across his chest, looking at the three of them with an indifferent expression. Before I answer your questions, can someone tell me something? Zheng Mu's eyes were dull, but he looked directly at the three of them with pressure. Classmate Leng Bingyue, classmate Jiang Lanlan, oh, and our classmate He Shang Yun, what do you want to do when you burst in so excitedly and call me a bastard? Leng Bingyue's pretty face turned slightly pale, and she couldn't help but look at Jiang Lanlan and the two men on the side, but she sadly discovered that they were also looking at her with pleading eyes at this moment. Seeing that the three of them could not say a word, Zheng Mu sneered, 
and his body was trembling slightly at this moment. As if he was deliberately enduring something. Since no one has answered, how about I take a guess? Zheng Mu's eyes narrowed slightly, with a sarcastic sneer on his lips. You are here to catch rape, right? As soon as these words came out, the expressions of the three people suddenly changed wildly, and they hurriedly waved their hands and shook their heads. Even Ling Bingyue had lost his opinion at this moment. No. Absolutely not, we, we are just worried about you, you haven't come out for two days, we. Jiang Lanlan also hurriedly agreed. Yes, yes, we are worried about you and afraid that you will be too stressed, so. However, before the three of them finished speaking, Zheng Mu's face suddenly twitched, as if he was irritated. Get out. An angry scolding came from Zheng Mu's mouth. The three of them were stunned for a moment, but when they saw Zheng Mu's face that seemed to choose someone to eat, they all did not dare to say a word and hurriedly retreated and closed the door. Kai Shinkuan, who was waiting anxiously below for fear that his boss would be caught doing something, heard the sound of the elevator and immediately looked over. But all they could see was panic and fear in their expressions, and they were complaining and worrying about each other and each other. Jiang Lanlan looked panicked, her eyes were slightly red, you you you. He Shan Yun was even more miserable than he could tell. Not long ago, Zheng Mu saved his father with something as precious as Nao Yu and Dan without asking for anything in return. The family members were still asking her to find an opportunity for Zheng Mu to visit her home. Today, because Zheng Mu didn't even express his feelings, but because of his one-sided feelings, he followed Ling Bingyue and the others to visit Zheng Mu in a strange identity. Now, he must hate me very much. I, I must have become an unreasonable person in his eyes. Ling Bingyue's face turned pale, and her mind went blank. This was the first time she had seen Zheng Mu so angry since she was a child, with an expression that was obviously suppressing something. Are you trying to save her face as much as possible? At the same time, Zheng Mu, who had been standing behind the desk on the top floor, suddenly sighed. Call. Mira Jane didn't say a word, but immediately ran towards the bathroom on the side. Thinking of the strange experience just now, Zheng Mu couldn't help but smile. Picking up the phone, he silently sent a message to his good wingman Kai Shinkuan. Keep your equipment tonight and I'll modify it for you. Kai Shinkuan, thank you so much, foster father. Licking dog face. When Zheng Mu walked down the stairs, there were also beautiful maids behind him, arranged on both sides behind him. In addition, several T-800s each carry a large storage backpack. Ji Kuan, please lead someone to sort these things into categories and choose a floor in our headquarters to put them up. From now on, they will be the internal member benefits of our Wheel of Truth Guild. Although many of them are low-level things, if you give me some time to study, I can also get more advanced props and equipment. Kai Shinkuan looked confused. When he saw the contents of the storage pocket, especially after seeing the attributes above, he took a deep breath. Just as he was about to say something, he came up with his own correction. Looking at most of the guild members who were here at the moment, Zheng Mu cleared his throat. Although there are still some guilds in Weiguan campus now, I can tell you here with certainty that this situation will not last long. I will definitely wipe them out soon and return Weiguan campus to a good professional growth environment. Looking at the adoring eyes of everyone, Zheng Mu's eyes were dull. Even when his eyes swept across the bodies of Leng Bingyue and the others, there was no change at all. The Wheel of Truth has only been established for a few days. I don't expect you to believe what I say now, but I still want to solemnly tell you here. The footsteps of the Wheel of Truth Guild will definitely not just stay on the land of the Southwest Military Attaché and Weiguan campus. Our future will be a broader and unknown height. After Zheng Mu finished speaking, several people in the crowd suddenly roared. President, we believe in you. That's right. Kill all their guilds. Our Wheel of Truth is the truth. Destroy the Sea Dragon Guild. Long live Boss Zheng Mu. Zheng Mu listened to the roar of the crowd, first he was stunned, and then he sighed in his heart. After all, they did not understand that the rhetoric they just said was not to boost morale, and the higher future did not refer to the subsequent battle with the president of the Sea Dragon Guild. 
The Sea Dragon Guild has now completely disappeared in Zheng Mu's eyes. Wang Hai, the so-called strongest person in Weiguan campus, in Zheng Mu's opinion, is no longer someone worthy of attention. He waved his hands to indicate that everyone should go about their own business. Zheng Mu called Kai Xinkuan over. He pointed at the newly made mechanical maids behind him. These are mechanical creations made by me. They do not have any combat capabilities, but they are all tireless life professionals. There are four pharmacists, three tailors, three charm makers, and five blacksmiths. Among them, how about the blacksmiths? We still need to let them go to the forging area to try. Zheng Mu explained some details, but Kuei Xinkuan was almost unsteady at this moment. I don't know if it was excitement or fear, but I was trembling. Boss, boss, I know you are awesome, but how can you create such a mechanical creation? This thing is definitely approved by heaven. Zheng Mu smiled faintly, and with a thought, the basic information of these mechanical maids appeared. Name, Living Assistance Robot Pharmacist No. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Zheng Mu. Level, Blue Elite. Durability, 800800. Defense, 320. Skill, Junior Pharmacist, when there are sufficient materials, you can make white ordinary level potions in the catalog without cooling time. There is only one skill. The current conditions are limited. I can only temporarily let them make white ordinary grade potions. But it's okay. There is no labor cost. It is our internal member welfare. The amount distributed every month can be larger. Zheng Mu said, with more or less helplessness on his face. These mechanical creations can only be said to be his leisure work or testing machines. It was made using materials purchased from the resource management agency and based on the blueprints of service robots like Tifa and the others. Later, through the skill module seal engraving, the life-related professional skill books purchased from the resource management center that no one wanted at all were used on them. The result is very good. Although it may be limited by the materials of his own body, Cheng Mu can only successfully add the white ordinary level skill blueprint to them. But it also proved very successfully that in his hands, it is not difficult for life professionals to make mechanical creations. It is almost foreseeable that such forces under Zheng Mu will become more and more powerful in the future. Combat type mechanical creations, mechanical creations with powerful auxiliary functions similar to bases, plus the current life professional mechanical creations are complete. He alone will represent a powerful force that cannot be shaken. Look at those powerful families, guilds, and even countries. No matter how strong a professional is, in this world full of monsters, even an SS-level professional like the God of Protection is likely to fall. Pure personal strength Zheng Mu never believed that glory could last long. Night When Zheng Mu was preparing to exchange some academic issues with Mira Jane, who had changed her clothes, he suddenly seemed to sense something. The next second, the light on Mira Jane's body in front of her lit up, and the skin that belonged to Zheng Mu disappeared, replaced by the dress from before. There was a knock on the door, and He Shang Yun's voice came from outside. Classmate Zheng Mu, have you had a rest? Chapter, 89 He Shang Yun's obviously slightly worried voice sounded from outside. Zheng Mu was slightly startled. He didn't expect that someone would come to look for him at this time, and it was He Shang Yun who had done something like that during the day. Zheng Mu thought and slowly walked out of the bedroom. At this moment, the two maid robots on both sides of the door immediately opened the door slowly and welcomed He Shang Yun who was outside the door. When He Shang Yun saw Zheng Mu in the huge living room, the latter was looking at the piles of documents from the guild management office on the tea table. Seeing this scene, there was obviously nothing unusual about the person. The look of shame on He Shang Yun's pretty face became even more intense. When I thought about the impulsive behavior of myself, Ling Bingyue and others during the day, I could no longer bear the torment in my heart. He bowed down to face Cheng Mu. Zheng, classmate Cheng Mu, I'm sorry for what happened during the day. I was rude and impolite. Please forgive me. Zheng Mu raised his head slightly, and his expression, which he had tried to keep calm, suddenly trembled. Almost failed on the spot. 
The angle is too tricky and the capital is too strong. Zheng Mu said that it is difficult for him not to forgive the other party, but he will never forgive the other party so easily. Well. A long sigh came from Zheng Mu's mouth. When he Shang Yun raised his head, he happened to meet Mu Shuang's eyes full of disappointment and bitterness. Classmate Shang Yun, the acquaintance between you and me was originally a misunderstanding. I admit that I was rash and rude first, but I have also admitted my mistakes and tried to find ways to make up for my image in your heart, but. Looking at He Shang Yun's delicate face, Zheng Mu's face was filled with sadness and weakness. Sure enough, the prejudice in people's hearts is like a big mountain. No matter how hard you try, you will never be able to change it. Zheng Mu stood up and walked slowly to He Shang Yun. For 3-3 three, three at close range, the latter could even smell the faint scent of sandalwood on Zheng Mu, which made her body feel weak. What made her even more confused was that Zheng Mu was staring at her with an extremely disappointed look. In the heart of classmate He Shang Yun, I should already be a heinous and lecherous person, right? No. No. Seeing He Shang Yun's anxious look for an explanation, Zheng Mu secretly smiled in his heart. Sure enough, she was a little girl with no emotional experience after all, no matter how stubborn she had been before. If you don't understand the sinister intentions of this scumbag Zheng Mu at this moment, then you can only be like a sheep in the tiger's mouth. Isn't it? Classmate He Shang Yun and the two of them came to your door so aggressively today. Many members of the guild saw it. If it weren't for retaliation for my rude behavior towards you. What is the position of He Shang Yun, who together with Leng Binyue and the others came to trouble me? Unknowingly, there was a layer of nervous sweat on He Shang Yun's smooth forehead. The rhetoric that he had planned before coming was faced with Zheng Mu's sharp and unforgiving question. There is absolutely no use for it. He Shang Yun opened his mouth and wanted to say something nonchalantly, but he didn't know what to say for a long time. You can't say that you like him and don't want anything to happen between him and those mechanically created women. He Shang Yun couldn't say anything, but seeing Zheng Mu pressing closer and closer, he forced her to the corner in the blink of an eye. Looking at Zheng Mu who was getting closer and closer, He Shang Yun seemed to notice something, and Xia Fei's cheeks twitched. Classmate He Shang Yun, don't you think you should appease the heart of your father's benefactor who was hurt by you? For the next whole day, Zheng Mu once again did not appear in the sight of the guild members. They stayed in the residence on the top floor of the union headquarters all day, and because of what happened before, Ling Binyue and Jiang Lanlan did not dare to face Zheng Mu, who was obviously angry with them. While feeling distressed, she could only hope that Zheng Mu would accept their apology after his anger subsided a little. However, they would never expect it at this moment. Zheng Mu's hypocritical anger and powerful strength had already been released on this day, when they were secretly worried, without any estimation. President, Wang Hai, the president of the Sea Dragon Guild, has returned from school. It seems that he is ready for a duel with you tomorrow. Wearing a nightgown casually, Zheng Mu waved a glass of red wine in his hand. Looking at the scenery outside the window, the city of Shindu is bustling with lights and feasting. However, in the area outside the city where monsters may spawn at any time, you can see scenes of battles breaking out from time to time. Hearing Mira Jane's report behind him, he smiled lightly. After initially agreeing to Wang Hai and the others to postpone the guild war for a few days, the other party took a dozen people and left the campus that day. The specific whereabouts are unknown, but when he comes back this time, he just doesn't know what amazing trump card he has prepared for his junior. Glancing in the direction of the bedroom, Tifa and Mary Rose walked out carrying some tattered clothes and cleaned up Zheng Mu's messy bedroom. Sea Dragon Guild Brother, that guy hasn't moved at all in the past two days while you were out, and he almost never came out of their guild headquarters. Seeing his eldest brother coming back, Wang Jia immediately reported what happened to Zheng Mu in the past two days. Hearing this, Wang Hai's slightly tired face finally showed some relaxed smile. Seeing that after learning about his return, several other Weiguan campus guild presidents who arrived at their guild headquarters early nodded. Hearing this, although Wang Hai did not clearly explain the trump card in his hand, these people were slightly relieved. Wang Hai looked at a few people and suddenly spoke. Guys, no matter whether I defeat or even kill that guy Mu this time, 
we have no place in Southwest Military Attaché University. You should understand. At this time, everyone nodded. They are not fools. When they were dueling with Zheng Mu, the referee's attitude was beyond obvious. Completely letting Zheng Mu go, and even supporting Zheng Mu to clean up those who have been entrenched for a long time, has turned from the original product of the competition system into a cancer that currently inhibits the growth of newcomers at Southwest Military Attaché University. It was obvious that the upper management of the school wanted to deal with these little minions, but they had to worry about some means and chose this method. Regardless of the outcome of the duel between Zheng Mu and Wang Hai tomorrow, the outcome of these guilds is already doomed. I have explained to some senior members of the guild in the past two days that most of them are ready to drop out. With our strength, after leaving, we can apply to the professional union to establish a new guild. You can have a prosperous life. But President Wang, you can't just let him go tomorrow because of this. You agree to him that we can leave on our own, and losing the fight and being forced to leave by the other side are completely different things. Listening to everyone's chatter, Wang Hai just nodded. After everyone left, Song stayed alone in his office. However, a square formation chart suddenly appeared in Wang Hai's hand. I was able to collect more power, but I didn't expect that I was hit by you. But that's fine, let me try this Red Warrior level equipment to see if it really lives up to its name mechanic. It's really a profession that is underestimated. Wang Hai murmured, with a dangerous light flashing in his eyes. Zheng Mu's powerful fighting ability, his full name was present at the scene, and he watched every scene very seriously. In addition, he collected some information about mechanics in the past two days, and after understanding the situation of mechanics in more detail. Even he had to admit that Zheng Mu was really difficult. The opponent's health and energy are directly bound to the mechanical creations. If you don't kill all the opponent's mechanical creations, it is completely wishful thinking to kill Zheng Mu with one blow. Even Wang Hai never thought that his most powerful offensive skill could kill Zheng Mu, a disguised human shield warrior, with one move. As for fighting the opponent's mechanical creations, the solution must be the same as those guild leaders who hated the Northwest before. Being completely dragged into the quagmire, as long as one blow is successful on the body, he will immediately face the end of being swarmed and eaten. There was no need for any publicity at all. The stands in the duel arena were filled with people early on. It's not that these people don't want to sit, it's just that there are too many people and it can easily accommodate tens of thousands of people. Today, the stands were packed with people. Wang Hai sat on a chair in the corner of the field, holding the 445 rare purple main prong in his hand. At the same time, the opponent was armed to the teeth, wearing ice blue chainmail, and had bracelets on his arms that could obviously increase the strength of his skills. Under the observation of some people onlookers, everyone saw several bottles of potions of different colors hanging on Wang Hai's waist. Hiss, it turns out to be a purple rare level attack speed potion and a berserk potion. Wang Hai is really ruthless this time. Don't think about how perverted that mechanic is. He could beat almost all the guild presidents of Weiguan campus to the ground while sleeping. In the end, no one dared to go up to the duel and gave up on the spot. Everyone was talking a lot, but as time went by, no one saw Zheng Mu arrive for a long time, and they all started to look around in confusion. Why hasn't the boss come yet? The time is almost here. Sang Luo couldn't sit still anymore and stood anxiously at the door of the duel arena. Kai Xinkuan called on his cell phone, but no one answered. Above the stands, Leng Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan, who were sitting at the front of the Wheel of Truth Guild, looked at each other. Have you ever gone to see him? Jiang Lanlan pouted and shook her head. I don't dare, what about you? Leng Bingyue was silent. To be honest, Zheng Mu and she had grown up together. Due to some emotional entanglements between the adults on both sides, Leng Bingyue had always made sarcastic comments to Zheng Mu. But Zheng Mu had never sent an angry signal to her like this time. This made her feel uneasy and hesitant even though she was used to being strong in front of Zheng Mu. Just when the two of them were confused and didn't know how to deal with such a thing, Zheng Zhuang's figure finally appeared in front of everyone. However, what surprised everyone slightly was that there was a beautiful and graceful figure following behind the other party. Official He Shang Yun. 
Hiss, the boss couldn't have captured the beautiful Haida. Kai Shinkuan took a careful glance at Ling Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan, who were still whispering about something over there. The two of them may not have thought that the competition between the two of them had been preempted by He Shang Yun, who had only appeared next to Zheng Mu for a few days. At this moment, when Zheng Mu appeared, he was still holding a cup of Hsiang in his hand. Cloud like milk tea. Seeing Zheng Mu walking so calmly and calmly into the field, Wang Hai, who had been sitting in the corner, finally took a deep breath and stood up slowly. This should be regarded as the first real face-to-face -face between you and me, right? I never thought that a mechanic could force the likes of us to this point. But in the entire Blue Star, you are the only one who can take a profession like the mechanic, which is targeted by heaven, to this point. Zheng Mu, suck, suck, suck. Wang Hai's hand holding the trident tightened immediately. It's one thing to watch from the stands, but it's another thing entirely to face this guy Zheng Mu in person. This guy really knows how to provoke. Seeing Zheng Mu's innocent face, even pretending to be stupid, Wang Hai took a deep breath and decided not to talk nonsense. For today's duel with Zheng Mu, he had racked his brains to come up with several ways to deal with it. Just like when he faced other guild leaders, Zheng Mu still didn't have any weapons or equipment on him this time. He was simply wearing a dark red windbreaker with one hand in his trouser pocket. Holding a cup of milk tea in one hand, he seemed not to notice even if the referee kept winking at him, asking him to take it seriously. See Dragon Guild President Wang Hai vs. Truth Will Guild President Zheng Mu, the duel begins. With the referee's order. The next moment, circles of water elemental shield suddenly erupted around Wang Hai's body. While Wang Hai was drawn into it, he pointed the trident in his hand toward the sky. The rustling light rain fell immediately, and in the blink of an eye, it turned into a heavy rain within the scope of the dual field. You have entered the rain curtain skill range and continue to obtain the abnormal status slowness. On the panel, a message reappeared. Zheng Mu's expression remained unchanged, but the shadows under his feet began to surge rapidly. In the blink of an eye, the group of liquors that had torn apart dozens or twenty guild presidents alive appeared one after another under the leadership of Black Claw. Without Jing Mu's orders, the next moment he rushed towards Wang Hai, who was waving a trident. Amidst the huge rain curtain, Tian Hai's strength was obviously much stronger than those of the guild leaders Mu had fought against before. The group of liquors who were able to beat the guild leaders to flight were temporarily restrained by Wang Hai's various skills when facing Wang Hai. This made Jing Mu couldn't help but think of some information about the other party. A level professional Heiluhu. A profession that combines the two professions of mage and warrior. The appearance of the opponent made Jing Mu couldn't help but think of the movie virtual character Aquaman in his previous life. Although there is no such explosive muscle feeling, Looking at the field at this moment, in the crazy rain curtain, for water avatars, are separated, and accompanied by bursts of skills, it's actually a short. He temporarily destroyed several ordinary liquors of his own. Zheng Mu couldn't help but look at the other party. In a sense, this was the only time in Zheng Mu's many battles with these presidents that a mechanical creation was destroyed. When he saw the battle scene, Wang Hai quickly showed the results of the battle. Wang Jie suddenly became excited and started to make people wave the flag and shout. Brother, come on. Brother is invincible. President, teach that boy how to be a good man. Take revenge for us. President Wang is invincible. Kill that damn mechanic. My contribution points will be wiped out by that grandson. The movement or sound behind him didn't move Wang in the slightest. As the strongest person in Weiguan campus, Wang Hai did not dare to be careless at this moment. His gaze was very clear. As more and more liquors were destroyed by him, he finally began to consciously move closer to Zheng Mu. Dang dang! The fierce metal collision sound, accompanied by the sudden appearance of the Black Claw, instantly caused a buzz in the rain. Black Claw's attack made his nerves tense to the extreme. However, at this time, in the rain, another familiar huge figure appeared, officially Optimus Prime. Boom boom boom. The cannon blasted towards his face, but Wang Hai shouted loudly. The next moment, the armor on his body suddenly lit up, and ten heads appeared around him and kept shouting. 
Fighting Dragon. After the cannon hit Wang Hai, it was only able to make the opponent's health bar tremble slightly. Then he was passively healed by the jewelry with HP recovery effect. Ha ha ha. That kid is doomed. All his mechanical creations have been cracked by my brother. Chapter, 90. Ha ha ha. That kid is doomed. All his mechanical creations have been cracked by my brother. Wang Jia was so excited that he could even shout like crazy. In the battle scene at this moment, Zheng Mu's eyes clearly showed some surprise as he watched the liquors rushing left and right amid the siege. The trident in his hand was waving like a tiger, and every time he released his skills, he directly grasped the best time. Even these liquors under Zheng Mu, with the blessing of the skill combat analysis, can learn the opponent's attack actions one second in advance. However, he would be accurately hit by the opponent's skills every time. Zheng Mu stretched out a hand and looked at the rain falling above his head. He didn't even care if he got wet. Have you seen from previous battles that my mechanical creation can learn the enemy's movements in advance, so you use such a range of debuff skills right from the start? Zheng Mu murmured, looking at the liquors under his command. After learning about Wang Hai's movements, they were unable to dodge accurately due to the limitation of the slowness effect. Boom! Click! Dang dang! Amidst the collision of metal, the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet suddenly trembled twice, and the next moment more than a dozen liquors rushed out and joined the battle group. At this moment, Optimus Prime's huge body also saw the opportunity. Suddenly, the hot melt knife popped out from his wrist. Amidst the fierce sound of steam, the scorching broadsword fiercely moved towards the person who had just stabilized his body under the sudden attack of the Black Claw. Wang Hai. On the stands, everyone's pupils shrank when they saw this scene. Optimus Prime's size puts him at a disadvantage in such a duel, but his single target attack power is obvious to all the spectators present. Once attacked. For the person being attacked, it is an operation to remove the health bar. Behind Zheng Mu, the mechanical creations under Zheng Mu's command were caught in a fierce battle at the beginning. The members of the Wheel of Truth Guild, who were extremely worried, saw this scene, and their palms suddenly sweated nervously. At this moment, except for Optimus Prime's attack that has landed on Wang Hai's head. The Black Claw that was blocked just now used Dark Crypt, rising from behind Wang Hai, and the Sharp Claws were already rushing towards the opponent's back. Optimus Prime fuck him to death. Kai Shinkuan roared excitedly. The next moment, under everyone's gaze, with a roar, Optimus Prime suddenly hit Wang Hai's head. The icy blue dragon phantom surrounding it trembled for a moment before finally losing its durability and shattering. Boom! In an instant, everyone present suddenly stood up nervously. However, before everyone could react, Wang Hai, who was supposed to be seriously injured, suddenly erupted and turned into large raindrops. Wow! The bursting rainwater suddenly turned into a water prison, wrapping the huge Optimus Prime in it on the spot. Wang Hai's figure suddenly emerged from the water on the ground, but under everyone's shocked gaze, he had already arrived in front of Zheng Mu. In the stands, Wang Jia and other members of the Hailong Guild, as well as the presidents of the major guilds who had high hopes for Wang Hai, all looked ecstatic. Ha ha ha! That kid Zheng Mu is about to die. That is my elder brother's level 430 skill water prison shadow. It can not only be used quickly before being attacked, but also let the water avatar bear the attack on his behalf. The destroyed water avatar, it can also limit attackers. Some people present who had experienced this skill would shake their heads and sigh. The A-level Haluho profession, if divided into A-level, is already in A-existence. It is only one step away from the S-level profession. The magic attack is not low, and the physical attack is also remarkable. Plus there must also be substitute methods for assassin-type professions and limited skills. Wang Hai has been the strongest person in Weiguan campus for so many years, and he deserves it. Zheng Mu, a mechanic was so close. If there were no other mechanical creations to resist, he would have to accept the result of being ravaged by Wang Hai. At the same time, Wang Hai came to Zheng Mu, but there was no trace of joy on his face. His eyes were obviously wary of the shadow under Zheng Mu's feet, 
as if he was on guard against a ferocious mechanical creature rushing out from there at any time. The trident in his hand suddenly stabbed out a sharp water attack. He has not forgotten what kind of mechanical creations appeared around Jing Mu. Those low-level mechanical maids can be ignored, but Zheng Mu also has a group of humanoid mechanical creations armed with shotguns, whose attack power cannot be ignored. Dang! There was a sound of metal colliding, and a T-800 figure suddenly appeared in front of Zheng Mu, blocking the attack. In an instant, a hole was made in the chest. The astonishingly precise internal mechanical structure was exposed, and piercing electric sparks erupted from the opponent's body. The ferocious attack actually killed the T-800 on the spot with just one move. Zheng Mu's eyes showed a little surprise at this moment. Although the T-800 has basically withdrawn from the level of combat sequence of mechanical creations under his command, its defense power is not something that ordinary people can kill with one move. As soon as he thought, another T-800 stood in front of him. However, at this moment, Wang Hai suddenly burst out with a terrifying momentum. It was obvious that he had used some buff skills to improve his condition. The next moment, under the horrified gaze of the audience, he transformed into a charger. If gods stand in the way, they will kill gods if they stand in the way of Buddha, they will kill Buddha. Zheng Mu had just taken out a dozen T-800s from his backpack. In the blink of an eye, more than half of them had been disabled by the opponent. Seeing that he was almost in front of Zheng Mu, the coldness in Wang Hai's eyes flashed away. The next moment, his feet suddenly stepped down. The soul of the sea is buried. A lot of rainwater had accumulated on the ground, and suddenly it turned into a huge palm and grabbed Jing Mu. Jing Mu raised his eyebrows, and his body, which had been motionless, suddenly burst out with a huge speed. Dodge and retreat in an instant. Wang Hai's attack speed with this skill is very fast, and it directly bypasses the T-800 blocking the two people. If Zheng Mu hadn't used Conservation Double, in time, clearing his own strength attribute to zero, his speed attribute would be reduced in a short time. Double. It is really possible to be caught directly by the opponent. However, Wang Hai, who failed to succeed in his attack, was not surprised but happy, and suddenly swung an even more fierce attack from his hand. The four T-800s in front of them were instantly separated. However, after he had solved the only obstacle between him and Zheng Mu, he did not immediately pursue him. The trident in his hand suddenly hit the ground, and a large amount of MP in his body was instantly consumed. Yelled. Second meaning Hai Ho Ling. In an instant, the rain on the ground suddenly trembled in the rain curtain. The next moment, it surged up and turned into chain cages made of rainwater in the blink of an eye, instantly sealing off all the mechanical creations such as the Black Claw that were originally going to defend themselves. You have entered the skill range of Mysterious Sea Order, and all hit targets within the range will enter the imprisonment state, lasting 5 seconds. The keen perception, coupled with the increased speed under Conservation Double, allowed Jing Mu to quickly avoid the blockade that suddenly stretched out on the ground. However, after looking at the clear information on the panel, Zheng Mu finally looked at Wang Hai with obvious shock. This A-level Heiluho profession is really powerful. With five seconds of full field control, in an actual battle, a big victory can definitely be achieved. For a professional of Wang Hai's level, there are too many things that can be done in five seconds. For example, at this moment, Wang Hai suddenly took out a square and simple formation plate from his arms, and saw the dazzling scarlet light in the field. Everyone present, including those who came from the official campus to watch the excitement, were in an uproar. Red Hero Level Equipment Where did that guy Wang Hai get such a thing from? Damn it! Wang Hai, that bitch, I thought this guy was hiding some tricks. How could he have Red Warrior Level Equipment? Leng Binyue and others all stood up in shock when they saw Wang Hai actually taking out the Red Warrior level equipment. Kai Shinkun frowned, and his brain that thought about Kai Yin Pao every day seemed to have suddenly received other business. In the blink of an eye, he had already thought of Wang Hai's purpose in fighting from the beginning to the present. Gritting your teeth. That bitch surnamed Wang really has a good plan. He has clearly calculated the situation of the boss mechanic profession. Seeing the worried looks from around him, Kai Shinkuan's face turned livid. 
That bitch obviously knows that the boss's HP is bound to the total amount of mechanical creations under his command, so he started to attack the enemy from the beginning and cut down the boss's subordinates as quickly as possible. Although their levels are low, they are like this a mechanical creation with a huge HP. Except for the boss's black claws and liquors, he tore all the remaining mechanical creations into pieces, reducing the total number of the boss's mechanical creations as much as possible, and then suddenly attacked the boss. The purpose is also to force out other mechanical creations hidden in the boss hands. Suddenly, Gu Ming, who was standing next to Kai Shinkuan, holding his sword and saying nothing, seemed to have thought of something. His eyes suddenly turned cold. So just now Wang Hai suddenly used skills to deal with the president himself. Seeing that the president no longer used mechanical creations to resist, but finally jumped away by himself, he decisively chose to use a skill that consumes a lot of money, but can instantly limit the mechanical creations in the field. Range control skills. Then the thing he has in his hand now. Gu Ming's hands clenched instantly, and Sang Luo and others on the side had already thought of something. Damn it! The boss is in danger. The shouts from behind reached his ears, but he looked at Wang Hai in front of him curiously. Wang Hai's reaction and layout after the series of battles started were already figured out by him. President Wang, it seems that he is worthy of being a senior, and he really has some real abilities. Zheng Mu's praise was only met with a sneer from Wang Hai. As the array disc in his hand shone brightly, energy walls appeared in the dual field in the form of Bagua diagrams at the next moment. Translucent walls surround Wang Hai and Zheng Mu, directly isolating all mechanical creations under Zheng Mu from the outside. Bang bang bang! Zheng Mu's eyes narrowed as he watched Optimus Prime and Black Claw finally come out of their confinement and wildly collide with the energy wall. And Wang Hai, who had been silent since he came on the field and devoted himself to fighting Zheng Mu, finally spoke. As he spoke, he took off bottles of medicine from his waist and poured them into his mouth in front of Zheng Mu. Classmate Zheng Mu, you are indeed the most talented person I have ever seen. The more you study the profession of mechanic, the more convinced I am of your potential. For hundreds of years, no mechanic has been able to create a mechanical creation that is recognized by heaven. But not only have you done it, each of the mechanical creations you have created is ingenious. The work is completely beyond the outside world's inherent impression of mechanics. Wang Hai's face was full of sincerity and deep regret. But you should never, absolutely shouldn't be a knife in the school's hands and attack us. Your future will be ruined by your arrogance. With that said, as Wang Hai drank bottles of potions one after another, his personal attributes suddenly increased sharply. A light flashed in Zheng Mu's eyes, above the other party's original information. Colorful buff states appeared in front of his eyes one after another. Alpha attack speed potion, purple rare consumable, after use, the attack speed increases by 32%, duration, 15 minutes. Harounds furious potion, purple rare consumable, after use, strength 500, defense 500, skill damage increased by 10%, duration, 10 minutes. Goo's Magic Marrow Potion, Purple Rare Consumable, after use, the maximum MP value is increased by 1 W, and the MP recovery speed is increased by 50%, duration, 10 minutes. Fairy's Revenge Blood, Purple Rare Consumable, restores a maximum of 200 MP points per second after use, duration, 10 minutes. However, this is not the end. After drinking all the potions, continuous rays of light lit up from Wang Hai's armor, necklaces, bracelets and other equipment. In an instant, people outside the field who also saw Wang Hai's attributes at this moment took a deep breath. Even the students in the official campus all shook their heads and sighed. Purple rare level consumables are the most effective among them. One bottle costs less than 300 contribution points. This thing is more expensive than some purple rare level equipment. It's rare that once a bottle is used, it can save your life. Now, in order to deal with this new mechanic, Wang Hai actually used four bottles in a row. Hey, this isn't over yet. Look at the light shining on the equipment on his body. The purple rare level equipment is the kind with skills. 
In addition to the Red Warrior level equipment used for control Wang Hai was really forced to use all his trump cards by this newcomer. At this moment, looking at Wang Hai's aura, as if he was possessed by a god, even some students from the school official campus present were not confident that they could deal with Wang Hai in this state. Looking again, there was no trace of equipment on Zheng Mu's body, except for the unfinished cup of milk tea still held in his hand. Even the mechanical creations on the periphery were unable to come to the rescue. No one present could think of any possibility for Zheng Mu to make a comeback. On the Wheel of Truth Guild side, the members are already in chaos. Jiang Lanlan made a phone call in front of everyone and shook her head anxiously, trying to save Zheng Mu from this duel. Leng Binyue gritted her teeth, put one hand on the long knife at her waist, and was already ready to rush directly into the field. Kai Shinkuan and others have already taken out their weapons. On the opposite side, seeing the reactions of the Wheel of Truth guild members, those guild members who had been bullied by Zheng Mu during this period, under the leadership of their own presidents, took out their own weapons. Own weapons. The situation is tense. As long as any one of them has a slight misfire, there will be a terrifying mass battle on the spot. At this moment, on a high platform in the duel arena that was not open to the public, the faces of Qin Ji and He Guang also darkened. General, is Zheng Mu really in danger now? Why did we think of restricting his base vehicle in the first place? One shot down, let alone Wang Hai Wang Tian, they are all scum. He Guang walked back and forth distressed and anxiously. Qin Ji frowned. At this moment, Zheng Mu was completely alone and helpless in the field, but there was no trace of fear or fear on the opponent's face. This made Qin Ji Du unable to think of any other cards that the opponent had not recognized. Thinking of Zheng Mu's potential, Qin Ji gritted his teeth. If there is a problem in a while, you take action immediately and save Zheng Mu. It's just a Weiguan campus. The worst is that we don't need this old face anymore and we directly take action to clear it up ourselves. Management Portal Chapter, 91 Wang Hai looked at Jing Mu, who still showed no fear in his expression. His eyes narrowed slightly. Said lightly. You don't have to count on your mechanical creations to be able to save you. It took me two years of planning to get this Red Warrior level equipment. This isolation force can last for half an hour. Wang Hai stared at Jing Mu, as if he wanted to see some fear on his face. I'm sure you still have mechanical creations in other places. The ones isolated outside right now are definitely not all of your mechanical creations, but... Wang Hai held the trident as if he was sure of victory, and said coldly while approaching Zheng Mu step by step. In half an hour, in my current state, even a boss with hundreds of thousands or even hundreds of thousands of health like those in the secret realm will be hacked to death by me here. Hearing what the other party said, Zheng Mu nodded with a look of approval. Even facing Wang Hai who was approaching step by step, he showed a very happy smile and clapped his hands under everyone's attention. Wonderful. There is no doubt that if I just heard that President Wang is the strongest person in Weiguan campus before, now I have to say that I, the strongest person, deserve the title. The proud look in Wang Hai's eyes flashed away, but the pace approaching Jing Mu became faster and faster. Don't you think it's a little late for President Zheng to say these flattering words at this time? Or do you think those who use you as a knife will save you in time? If this is the case, then you will be disappointed. Wang Hai looked cold, and with a flash of light in his hand, the array disc he had used before appeared again. The equipment information is fully displayed. 8 Seal Formation Diagram Remnant, Red Brave Level Special Equipment after use, a space confinement array can be formed within a specific range. Within 30 minutes, it cannot be broken or offset. Cooling time, one year. A look of understanding suddenly flashed in Jing Mu's eyes. No wonder this guy had the leisure to say such things to himself. It turns out to be space system equipment. President Wang's luck is really good. Although I don't know why you spent two years planning, this thing is indeed worth your two years of planning. Seeing that Wang Hai remained silent, more than a dozen clones suddenly appeared in the pouring rain all around, and instantly swarmed towards Zheng Mu and attacked. Seeing the attack that was almost at hand, 
Fu calmly shook the milk tea he had finished drinking in his hand. Yu Yu said. All President Wang's plans are wonderful, but it's a pity that you overlooked one thing. Who is it that is forced to be locked up here? Boom! The violent energy was accompanied by Zheng Mu's words. As soon as he finished speaking, there was a sudden wave of terror that made everyone present and even a thousand meters around the dual venue feel a sudden and creepy feeling. Suddenly the internet spread. He Guang and Qin Ji, who were about to go directly to rescue Zheng Mu, immediately stood there in shock after seeing the terrifying scarlet skeleton figure in the scene. Amidst the familiar screams, a figure suddenly flew out from behind. The huge force made it hit the space wall that was originally used to imprison Zheng Mu like a cannonball. Vomit. Wang Hai vomited a mouthful of blood in embarrassment and disbelief. Even the equipment on his body took effect at this moment and began to quickly restore his health bar. At this moment, Wang Hai's face instantly turned pale after seeing the figure next to Zheng Mu. How can it be? Like Wang Hai, staring at the center of the field as if seeing a ghost were the spectators in the surrounding stands. Hey, hey, this is no joke. Are you fucking telling me that this thing can also be a mechanical creation? How the hell does it look like a mechanical creation? Damn it, where did the school recruit this monster? Didn't nearly three quarters of the top military attaches in the southwest go to the military to perform missions and haven't appeared for several years? Why didn't this guy go to Songking University and chose Southwest Attaché instead? Red Brave Level Mechanical Creation, Red Brave Level Oh my god, is this guy really a human? At this moment, Zheng Mu stood with his arms crossed, his face as plain as before. With a slight teasing curve in the corner of his mouth, he looked at Wang Hai who was lying on the ground, his brain seemed to have shut down. President Wang, you are really smart. You have guessed all my other mechanical creations. However, how are you going to deal with the one in front of you? Let me introduce to you my proud work, the Red Brave Level Mechanical Creation. Uchiha no misfortune. As soon as Zheng Mu finished speaking, the handsome young man beside him smiled slightly, and his smile was full of evil. Please give me more advice. A voice that was plain and full of magnetism, as if it was born to be favored by the opposite sex, came out of Uchiha Musen's mouth. But it made everyone present feel as if they had fallen into an ice cave and were being tortured. Name, Magical Special Type Robot Uchiha Musen. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level, Red Brave Level. Durability, 25W25W. Skill 1, Breath of Ruin, Uchiha Musen contains an extremely unknown energy source, which can be used by itself and affect the surrounding environment and targets at the same time. There is no cooling time. Skill 2, Sharingan High Frequency Analysis, Uchiha Muzai can activate the function of his eyes to copy all physical damage skills and some magic damage skills of the target without cooling time. Skill 3, Sharingan Overclocking Mode, Kaleidoscope Sharingan activates the ruined breath energy source in the body and injects it into the Sharingan body, making it enter the overclocking kaleidoscope mode. In this state, the dynamic visual ability is increased tenfold, and unlocks Susanoo Fell Armor, no cooldown time. Skill 4, Evil Alien Species, condenses part of the breath of destruction into the target's body, destroys and transforms the target's body, and can control all the target's actions through the supreme command, no cooling time. Skill 5, Overclocking Regeneration, the damaged body part can be quickly restored in a very short time, cooling time, one hour. Zheng Mu stood behind Uchiha Musen, looking at Susanoo who was much taller than Optimus Prime, the excitement in his eyes flashed away. This taste is just right, the combination of Ghost King and Shura Zheng Mu smiled faintly. It seems that you are the only relative of President Wang's brother, right? What a pity. As he spoke, he ignored Wang Hai, whose expression changed wildly, and waved his hand to Uchiha Musen in front of him. Solve it quickly and be gentle. When Uchiha Musen heard this, the Budo Tamashii he held in his hand immediately rose. Following the opponent's movements, the jet black skeleton giant nearly ten meters tall also suddenly raised the terrifying long knife in his eyes. Elder Brother In the stands, a moment ago, he was proudly telling the people around him about his brother's greatness. Wang Jie, 
who had reduced Cheng Mu to a guy who had lost his luck, could no longer remain calm at this moment. In the space blockade, just the mechanical creation that Cheng Mu revealed some information other than skills directly made their scalps numb with shock. That terrifying attribute, and this obviously unusual skill at the moment. This made Wang Jia unable to have any confidence in his brother. Brother. Give up now. Give up now. Boom. With just one blow, Wang Jia in the space blockade felt a strong breath of death. You are infected with the breath of ruin and continue to enter the weak state. You are infected with the breath of ruin and continue to enter the poison state. You are infected with the breath of ruin and continue to enter a state of chaos. A series of prompts appeared on Wang Hai's panel. When the latter saw the personal attributes column, he almost suppressed the buff that he had spent millions of contribution points to get back. Wang Hai's heart felt like it was going to stop at this moment. Rolling and crawling, he hurriedly released water bodies one after another, and rushed towards Sheng Mu himself. At the same time, he hurriedly took out the potion to eliminate the abnormal state and prepared to drink it. But unexpectedly, at this moment, a fierce wind suddenly roared over. Boom! Wang Hai's entire body was instantly chopped into the air by this blow. The precious armor on his body fell to the ground with a cracking sound. When the ladder hit the space blockade hard again, the health bar had dropped by three quarters. However, when he was hit again, Riki was still hit directly. The debuffs that had already severely limited his strength were once again added to his body. Seeing that he could no longer clearly perceive the opponent's direction due to being in a state of confusion, even if he gritted his teeth and stood up quickly, he could only face the air in front of him and release his skills without thinking. Everyone who saw this scene understood. Wang Hai was defeated. Even though he had used 120% of his strength, he was still completely defeated in front of Zheng Mu. Zheng Mu. President Zheng. Don't kill my brother. Please don't kill my brother. Please. Zheng Mu, who was about to let Uchiha Muzin kill Wang Hai with one blow, suddenly rushed to the audience. In front of everyone, Wang Jia fell to his knees on the ground and kept begging. Zheng Mu was stunned for a moment, then shook his head, looking at Tian Hai who was shaking as if he was drunk. There must be quite a few newcomers who have kneeled in front of you and begged for mercy like today over the years, right? However, you just don't know how to restrain yourself at all. Zheng Mu looked around, scanning the guild members and president above the stands, his eyes filled with undisguised murderous intent. You must be wondering why I am willing to be a knife for others. This kind of effort can also bring me a smelly dirty job. Why shouldn't I do it to myself? Zheng Mu's voice spread throughout the audience, and the powerful strength in front of him made the old student present swallow a mouthful of saliva. Because, when I found out that you scum had turned a good school district into such a horrible state, I really wanted to kill you all. Zero request flowers. The undisguised murderous intention made everyone's expressions change wildly. At this time, Wang Hai's abnormal state finally gradually subsided. After finally seeing the direction of Zheng Mu and the others clearly, they didn't have time to wave the trident in their hands. The next moment, Uchiha Muzin didn't see any specific movements, and the latter suddenly trembled. A mouthful of old blood spurted out from his mouth. Under the horrified gaze of Wang Jia outside, the blood bar dropped directly to the level of blood skin. He looked lying on the ground, having completely lost his fighting ability. His brother, Wang Jia, was in great distress. The cry for mercy spread throughout the audience. However, the old students who were unclean could not protect themselves, and the old students who were clean did not dare to say a word. Even the newcomers here at the Wheel of Truth Guild looked indifferent. Even though they have been here for more than a week, to be honest, almost all of them cannot imagine such a chaotic, violent and disorderly place. It turned out to be the campus of a first-class professional university. Even though the professional is not a talkative character, it is obvious that the bottom line has been exceeded. On the high platform, He Guang and Qin Ji looked indifferent. If you are seriously ill, use strong medicine, although it is very likely that you will die. But when he thought of the newcomers who were undergoing the second round of first-class university assessment, Qin Ji made up his mind. The higher-ups should be able to evacuate some people recently. 
Taking advantage of this time, we will clean up all the smoky places in these campuses. On the day when the new recruits report, let our Southwest military attaché be completely reborn. Qin Ji gritted his teeth and looked at Zheng Mu who walked to Wang Hai's side and had a pistol in his hand without any intention of stopping him. Wang Jie's bloodshot and hateful gaze came, but Zheng Mu smiled slightly. The sound of a gunshot frightened the old students in the stands and made them tremble. Wang Hai's health bar disappeared. The dead can no longer die. Ah! Ignoring Wang Jie's crazy cannibalistic gaze, Zheng Mu looked at the senior students of Weiguan campus on the stands. It seems that I won today's match. If that's the case, let's start the next round. What? No one understood what Zheng Mu meant by this next round. However, some of the guild presidents present then shrank their pupils and suddenly stood up with their expressions changed drastically. Zheng Mu, do you really want to kill us all? At worst, you can set a rule and we will all abide by it. Do you know how many of us are here? Hear the other party's lustful and angry roar. With Wang Hai's death, the surrounding space blockades also dispersed. Zheng Mu then picked up the array plate from the ground and put it in his bag. Sorry, I will set the rules, but these rules are to control people. As for you cancers, you can either pack your things and leave, or wait until I have someone go to the guild management office. Continue to challenge one by one. Speaking of this, Zheng Mu paused slightly. There was undisguised contempt on his face. This time, let's decide on a three-minute round, right? In the stands, after everyone in the Weiguan campus heard that Jing Mu was going to do everything right, everyone could no longer sit still. Some old students who were already worried turned pale. White. Under the threat of death, a choice has been made quickly. The remaining people from the official campus looked at Jing Mu from a distance with solemn expressions. Fortunately, our school official campus has not reached the point where it is out of control like the Weiguan campus. Otherwise, if this guy is promoted to our school official campus, you will be dead again. Colonel Chi sighed solemnly, his eyes always fixed on the mechanical creation next to Zheng Mu. Just when the other party took action, even he felt a strong sense of threat. This is even if the attack is not directed at him. Chi, Colonel Chi, is this kind of monster coming to our official campus soon? On the side, Major Li, who was familiar with Wang Hai before, was trembling uncontrollably when he spoke. For no other reason, although he is not a heinous person, there are still some unclean things about him. It's not like he has never done anything like bullying the new recruits in the school's official campus. Colonel Chi naturally saw the other party's worries, but he shook his head. Stop dreaming. If before there was that mechanical creation, he still needed to go to the official campus, now. I'm afraid it won't be long before we call him general when we see him. What? The other side. As soon as Jing Mu walked to the stands, Lang Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan ran over immediately, with hot water and towels in their hands. However, there was someone who was faster than the two of them. Jing Mu, hurry up, you scared me just now, you. Seeing the intimate movements, and personally wiping the raindrops off Xing Mu's body, Lang Bingyue and Lang Bingyue felt as if they were struck by lightning. This beachy stabbed four people in the back. Chapter, 92 Lang Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan looked in disbelief at He Shang Yun, who was obviously too close to Xing Mu. I just felt my head was buzzing. The two looked at each other and saw the anger in each other's eyes. Okay, they were still wondering why He Shang Yun suddenly disappeared in the past two days. I originally thought I was frightened by Zheng Mu's angry performance that day, but now it seems this guy who looks like a good girl turned his back on the two of them and just stole the house. The other members of the Wheel of Truth Guild on Zheng Mu's side couldn't care less about the infighting between the three women at the moment. They were already in a state of excitement because of Zheng Mu's superb performance today. Boss, boss. Why are you always so awesome? We were just about to have a bloody battle with those guys on the opposite side. Yes, yes, boss, you have just been to Southwest Military Attaché University for a few days, and you have directly aspired to become the strongest person in Weiguan campus. It is absolutely incredible. 
Ha ha ha, I just don't know how wonderful the expressions on the faces of those who have re-registered as Southwest Military Attaché will be when they come half a month later and know what you have done, boss. Kai Shinkuan was so excited that he wanted to kick He Shang Yun away from Zheng Mu and replace him. Gu Ming, a frigid guy on the side, also flushed with excitement. He stared unblinkingly at Muzan Uchiha, who was standing behind Jing Mu. Although he was elegant, he was full of danger. There are not a few people who are secretly looking at Uchiha Muzan curiously. For example, among these newcomers, many girls can't control their eyes and are almost completely glued to each other's body. Zheng Mu may not have much other abilities, but for him, things like pinching faces are easily accomplished. That evil image will definitely make those girls who have no resistance to this kind of boys fall for them at a glance. Just when Zheng Mu was surrounded by people, Qin Ji and He Guang suddenly appeared. Classmate Zheng Mu, General Gu wants to see you. Through the teleportation array, under the leadership of Qin Ji and the other two, Zheng Mu was quickly taken to the general campus. However, what makes Zheng Mu a little confused is that this place is completely different from what he imagined. Although the pavilions and pavilions are antique and completely resemble an ancient Chinese garden, and are definitely exquisite and elegant, this does not look like a place suitable for military generals to stay. Do you feel like this is not like a professional university, but like a nursing home? There was a loud sound, and a voice with an obvious smile came from behind. When Zheng Mu turned around, he saw Gu Xingdong, the vice president of Southwest Military Attaché University who he had met in the bone-swallowing desert. The latter waved his hand and motioned to sit down in a pavilion, while He Guan took up the task of making tea and pouring water. Principal Gu, I didn't know you. Zheng Mu really wanted to ask, but was interrupted by the other party with a sigh. You should call me General. Today's Dragon Kingdom does not lack an ancient principal, but it is in urgent need of some generals who can stand on the front line. Zheng Mu frowned, but still nodded respectfully. General, did you call me here because of the matters at the lieutenant campus? Ha ha ha, Weiguan campus. Speaking of Weiguan campus, us old guys originally thought that we could hone you there, but as a result, you passed the test in just a week or so. Obviously Zheng Mu killed a lot of people, but Gu Xingdong was laughing very happily at this moment. Suddenly his eyes looked at Achi Hamuzin, who had been standing silently aside. The mechanical creations you are making now are really beyond our understanding. If it weren't for the fact that the information from heaven is not deceptive, I would not be able to believe that the person in front of me is actually a mechanical creation. Before Jing Mu said anything, Achi Hamuzin smiled faintly. Master Overlord has created everything for me, and the perfection in your eyes is just one of the many works of the royal family. Hearing Achi Hamukai's reaction that was completely the same as that of ordinary people, Gu Xingdong saw it with his own eyes and was even more stunned at this moment. Then a certain decision in my heart became more and more firm at this moment. Suddenly asked Cheng Mu. As long as you have enough advanced materials, can you create more powerful mechanical creations that are recognized by heaven? Cheng Mu was stunned for a moment, then thought about it and nodded. Now I can process materials no higher than the Red Warrior level, and convert these materials into mechanical components with the same performance and echo my inner thoughts. As for the current limitation on my development, it seems that the only thing that limits my development is materials. As soon as these words came out, Gu Xingdong couldn't help but take a deep look at Jing Mu, and then winked at Qin Ji, who had been silent. The latter immediately took out a document bag that seemed to have been prepared long ago and placed it in front of Zheng Mu. Gu Xingdong sighed. I don't know if this decision is a backlash, but Mr. Ji seems to be very optimistic about you. Zheng Mu opened the document bag, and the contents inside were very simple. Apart from Zheng Mu's own file information, it was just a gold gilded certificate. When he opened his military officer's ID card, he saw the words Zheng Mu, rank of Major General written clearly on it. Zheng Mu raised his head in shock. I'm also surprised, but this is Mr. Li's intention. He even personally lobbied several other adults at this moment. You don't have any power in the military, and this military rank only has effect in this school. Zheng Mu suddenly understood. That is to say, I can also redeem things from the resource management office that only people from the general campus can redeem. 
Zheng Mu asked excitedly. After seeing the two people nodding, he immediately took a deep breath, stood up solemnly, and bowed to Gu Xingdong in front of him. Thank you General Gu for your cultivation. At the same time, if you have the opportunity, please help me tell Mr. Li that although I, Xing Mu, dare not say that I am a gentleman, I am not an ungrateful person. Gu Xingdong nodded with satisfaction, and patted Jing Mu's shoulder somewhat sentimentally. Boy, grow up quickly. We really need a strong younger generation to come to the front. Jing Mu frowned slightly and saw Qin Ji on the side also looked a little ugly. Suddenly, it seemed like something came to mind. General, did something happen on the front line? Zheng Mu didn't know where the front line he was talking about was, but he had been at the Southwest Military Attachment for a while, and Zheng Mu had very clearly realized that the situation the Southwest Military Attaché was in now was not because the higher-ups didn't want to take care of it. There should be more important things. Too much energy and manpower have been allocated. Gu Xingdong nodded. I can't reveal the specific situation, but after a while, a group of people from the front line will return to the campus to serve as lecturers and instructors. When you see them, you will understand the seriousness of the situation. When Zheng Mu was sent back to Weiguan campus by Qin Ji, and the two were about to leave, they were suddenly stopped by Zheng Mu. General Qin, I would like to ask, where is the secret realm of different time and space? Is it the front line we have been talking about? Qin Ji was obviously taken aback, and then he remembered that Jing Mu had exchanged materials at the resource management office, and nodded. I can't reveal anything extra to you. It won't be good for you to know so much now. But one thing is that the secret realm of different time and space is a dual field between countries. How many resources can be obtained in it every year will directly determine it is related to the country's second year, the monster explosion rate and the number of secret realms appearing nationwide. Zheng Mu suddenly looked stern. It can directly affect the potential of the whole country. One can imagine the cruelty of the secret realm of different time and space. Then were we plotted against someone from some country this time? Qin Ji nodded and spoke the names of the two countries in Zheng Mu's ear. Now, Zheng Mu's eyes were filled with murderous intent. Sure enough, even after coming to this world, the disgusting and shameless behavior of some countries is a fact that cannot be changed. Zheng Mu did not disclose that he had been promoted to a military rank and now directly became a general. After all, he was not a real general. Apart from a certificate, Zheng Mu had nothing. After all, the rank of major general is more like a permit to exchange for high-end supplies. With Wang Hai being killed in public by Zheng Mu, and his obvious attitude of getting things done, a large number of old students dropped out of Weiguan campus. The original guilds are also applying for dissolution at the guild management office one after another. Some guilds that still wanted to struggle, followed Zheng Mu and sent people to the guild management office, and after submitting challenge applications, they finally couldn't stand it any longer. Wheel of Truth Guild Headquarters Zheng Mu stayed here for several days in a row. Every day, he was either converting various materials purchased from the resource management office into mechanical components, or he started the jail-like smart core upgrade business again. However, besides him, there are three more people in Zheng Mu's top-floor residence now. Leng Binyue, Jiang Lan Lan, and He Shang Yun who had already had everything happen to him. There is no doubt that the appearance of He Shang Yun directly forced the arrogant Leng Binyue to boldly take a few steps forward again. Although she was somewhat embarrassed in her heart, she still insisted on choosing to live here. At this moment, the three women were lined up in a row, lying on the sofa, watching with curiosity as Zheng Mu produced another T-800 with a wave of his hand. Zheng Mu, didn't you say that the T-800 can no longer keep up with you? Why do you still need to do so much? Jiang Lanlan endured it again and again, but finally couldn't hold it back and ask this question. During this period, let alone her and Leng Binyue, even He Shang Yun sometimes appeared in front of Zheng Mu wearing bold clothes, but it did not let Zheng Mu get away from the matter at hand. Within a week, not only the T-800, but also the patrol eagle that filled more than a dozen storage backpacks was produced by Zheng Mu. Tifa placed another set of organized mechanical components in front of Zheng Mu. Of course I can't use it, but can't you new professionals use it? Leng Binyue, 
Jian Lan Lan, Yun. What do you call new professionals? Brother, you are a newcomer too. But before the three of them could figure out what Jing Mu was planning to do, a rapid ringtone came from the cell phone. Jing Mu answered the phone and Kai Xinkuan's voice came from it. Boss, come to the square teleportation array quickly, come quickly. Oh my god. Kai Xinkuan's voice was trembling, as if he was frightened by something, or suppressing some strong emotions. Zheng Mu frowned. The voice on the other end of the phone was very noisy, and he could vaguely hear the exclamations of many people. And when Zheng Mu arrived with people, he was also instantly stunned by the scene in front of him. Old Zhang. Why do you guys how do you? A familiar voice came from the side. Zheng Mu turned around and saw He Guang standing in front of a middle-aged man in military uniform with a heartbroken look on his face. At this moment, a pair of eyes looked at the man's empty arm with heartache but full of anger. Okay, it would be nice to be able to save a life. Many brothers have lost their names. Kai Xinkuan had suppressed murderous intent in his eyes. When he saw Zheng Mu arriving, he hurriedly approached him. Boss, these are our professional soldiers from the Dragon Kingdom, they. Zheng Mu patted him on the shoulder. Kai Xinkuan's father retired from the army, and he had certain feelings for the army. Zheng Mu clenched his hands tightly and looked around to see figures in military uniforms appearing from the teleportation array. However, some people are standing and some are sitting in wheelchairs. Disabled soldiers like Lao Zhang and He Guang's mouth are almost everywhere. Zheng Mu instantly thought of what Gu Xingdong told him a few days ago, how tragic the front line is, just look at these people. Damn, damn Bangzi in Japanese slaves. Zheng Mu gritted his teeth, the killing intent in his heart already boiling. These people present all graduated from the Southwest Military Attaché University and some other local professional military academies. Their current levels are at least over 60 like He Guang. Even these people are now suffering from various disabilities. Zheng Mu can already imagine how difficult it has been for the Dragon Kingdom in these years in the secret realm of different time and space. Boss, who did this? Damn it! It doesn't look like it was done by a monster. Zheng Mu nodded and squeezed out a sentence through his teeth. Notify all guild members and gather at the headquarters. I have something to announce. After taking a deep look at these elites of the Dragon Kingdom who would bid farewell to the front line in the future, Zheng Mu focused his eyes on the disabled areas on these people and turned around to leave. Among the Wheel of Truth Guild When Zheng Mu came back, everyone in the guild hall was talking about the teleportation square. Zheng Mu saw that everyone's face was full of indignation. There is no meaning of grinding. You have seen what happened just now, and I will tell you directly that the injuries of those seniors were all caused by sticks and Japanese slaves. They shamelessly attacked our soldiers. In an instant, everyone's eyes turned red. What? Those damn bastards. Shameless. In the monster areas bordering us and them over the years, their people have often robbed and driven away our Dragon Kingdom professionals. Some of us even died at the hands of those bastards. Damn it. We should really send out the Protector God directly to kill these two clowns. Looking at the excited crowd, the plan that had been prepared for this period of time took shape. While signaling everyone to be quiet, he said lightly. Whether a powerful man of the Protector's level can be dispatched is not something we can decide, but do you dare to go with me to the border area and take him away? Hearing this, everyone was startled at first, and then they all felt as if they had been injected with chicken blood. What the hell? President, do you mean that our Wheel of Truth Guild is going to cause trouble for those sticks and Japanese slaves? I'll go. I will definitely go for this boss matter. When I saw the news before, I had already wanted to kill them. Okay, boss, when are we going to leave? Seeing that the military spirit is available, Zheng Mu is directly what people need to carry to prepare for departure. Although Gu Feng was also excited, he couldn't help but express his worries. Boss, don't you need to report this matter to the school? Zheng Mu glanced at him but said nothing. Jiang Lanlan on the side had already stepped forward and grabbed the other party's ears. You will do whatever your uncle asks you to do. 
Can you show some courage like an S-class professional? Zheng Mu waved his hand. There is no need to report. We are just going to the wild areas as a guild to carry out collective activities. Besides do you still worry about the dangers of those low-level monsters bordering areas with me in charge? Gu Feng suddenly stopped talking. At this time, Leng Bingyue seemed to suddenly think of something and asked in surprise. Are you planning to train troops? Are those mechanical creations prepared these days for operations like today? Chapter, 93 Zheng Mu looked at the surprised looks of several people and nodded. Looking at the sky outside the window, his eyes showed solemnity. Sometimes knowing too much is really not a good thing. For example, at this moment, when I know that the Dragon Kingdom is facing a huge dilemma in the secret realm of different time and space and is in urgent need of a large number of new forces, I can't help but keep this matter deeply in my heart. Although it is different from the country before he traveled, the culture, writing, and beliefs here are no different. Coupled with the promotion and care given to him by seniors like Mr. Li, Zheng Mu must also find ways to do what he can. Xiao Shiba, I can't enter the secret realm of different time and space, but in this blue star field, you can't help me. The movement of all members of the Wheel of Truth Guild did not cause any huge movement. After all, there is a teleportation array available inside the guild headquarters building. Zheng Mu and others were carrying storage backpacks. In the hall, the faces of the 2,000 members of the Wheel of Truth Guild were filled with fighting spirit. After some adjustments on the teleportation array, a burst of light lit up. The teleportation coordinates leading to a monster area between Longhua and Bangzi have been determined. Under the leadership of Zheng Mu, 2,000 people quickly disappeared into the Southwest Military Attaché University without anyone noticing. At the same time, on the outskirts of the Goblin Forest, in an abandoned city on the border, the teleportation array that had not been operating for an unknown period of time suddenly erupted with a burst of piercing white light with a clicking sound. The professionals who were resting in the small town suddenly looked over in surprise. With such strong energy fluctuations, a lot of people must have come. When Zheng Mu walked out of the teleportation array with 2,000 guild members, the professionals here were all startled. Why are all the kids here? Don't you know that professionals with sticks here kill people? Hey, there are so many people, they should be newcomers to some kind of professional university, but why can't they see their leading instructors? Damn it, these people are fools, why are they going straight out of the city? Hurry! Stop them! When these professionals from the Dragon Kingdom saw these people walking directly to the sidelines, they all became uneasy. Anyone who can enter the professional university basically has a certain amount of talent, and at least they are all worthy of cultivating a career-increasing career. Compared with their D-level and C-level professions, it is simply much better. If these good seedlings died in the wild and were killed by those unhuman sticks, it would definitely be the loss of the people of the Dragon Kingdom themselves. Hey, hey, where is your instructor? Do you know where this place is? The outside is an area where only level LV20-440 people can move. Do you want to die? A big man with a beard, wearing heavy armor and dressed as a warrior hurriedly stopped in front of everyone. Looking at Jing Mu, who was obviously the leader, he looked solemn. Which professional college are you from? Don't you know that the Goblin Forest has been rounded up by the professional group from the Bangsi Kingdom recently? This place is not suitable for your leveling. Those guys in the wild are definitely a bit useless to us Dragon Kingdom professionals. No mercy. Let's upgrade somewhere else. Hearing this, Zheng Mu was startled at first, but behind him, Sang Luo, Kai Xinkuan and others heard that the professionals from Bangzi country dared to book the venue directly, and murderous intent suddenly appeared in their eyes. Zheng Mu's eyes signaled everyone to calm down. At this time, Uchi Hamuzan, who was not low in momentum in the team, stepped forward. Health care. He's their instructor. Don't worry, we just don't know how to get into the monsters in the goblin forest. The strong man relaxed a little when he looked at Uchiha Muzin, who gave him a creepy feeling just by standing there, even though he was not as strong as him. Nod. Before leaving, I made a special confession. Bangzi country has basically surrounded the goblin forest recently. Even the life professions are not allowed to go in to collect some materials. 
They have a lot of people. You have to be careful. Uchiha Musen smiled and nodded his thanks, but in the team, Jin Mu's eyes already showed the hunter's fanatical killing intent after hearing the news about his prey. Outside the moss covered city, Jin Mu did not directly let people rush into the goblin forest. They were all new professionals present. Except for himself, who was a pervert who could not be measured by ordinary standards, the only ones present were Kai Shinkuan, Ling Bing, them, Yao Dang Dang, and a group of level professionals. The combat effectiveness is remarkable. But this is remarkable, but it also has certain limits. It is obviously inappropriate to expect them to deal with professionals who are less than 20 levels above them. With a roar, a huge black shadow that everyone was familiar with appeared. It is Zheng Mu's red brave level mechanical creation transformers base. Seeing this familiar behemoth, everyone couldn't help but recall the roar of the opponent's artillery in the bone-eating desert, the terrifying sand waves, and the necrotic laser cannon that was simply beyond their ken. Ha ha ha, now that you have your base, boss, we can kill as many of those little Shiba as they come. San Luo rubbed his hands excitedly. He was at the scene when Jing Mu used the base's weapons. However, it was used to fry bugs at that time, but it is different today. When he thought of that terrifying weapon, falling on the heads of those little Shiba, Wulua became excited. As the base vehicle started, it finally stopped outside the goblin forest. Amidst the mechanical sound of clicking, a steel base appeared in front of everyone. Zheng Mu casually waved his hand and took out the results he had created these days. 400 T-800s are divided into groups of five, and each group can be assigned one. Not only does it allow Zheng Mu to easily gain a certain amount of experience, but it can also locate the locations of these people to facilitate communication and emergency response. 3,000 patrol eagles, even though the goblin forest is quite large. The reconnaissance system composed of these 3,000 patrol eagles is enough to have a panoramic view of most areas. Then there are pieces of things that look like watches. They are not high-end items they are white ordinary watches. After wearing them, you can retrieve some terrain information detected in the surroundings. Facilitates team response. When Zheng Mu told everyone how to use these things, everyone's face was filled with excitement. And when Zheng Mu asked the base to release all patrol eagles. After a while, everyone used their watches one after another to see the precise map detected in the surrounding area. When they saw the scanned figures and monster locations on it. Everyone couldn't help but take a breath of cold air. He Shang Yun had a look of resentment on his face. No wonder you were able to drive us out like dogs in the bone-swallowing desert. Isn't this a fool's errand? Zheng Mu laughed loudly and pointed at the figures moving in the goblin forest on the projection sand table in front of him, with a cruel arc at the corner of his mouth. Then let me ask you if you want to fool around with these guys. Fuck him. Fuck him to death. Ha ha ha, boss, with the help of you, my B-level trap master will finally come into use. Let's see if I don't trap these hateful sticks. We have formed a team, we have formed a team, we still have the same old rules in the desert, cooperate with each other. If I touch a stick, no one will be able to hold it back for a while, otherwise I will look down on him for the rest of my life. Keep it. Keep it. It's obvious that this bordering monster area is jointly owned by the two neighboring countries. Since these guys like this place so much, let's use it as a cemetery for them. This cemetery can only bury those professional people. I said it. Even Jesus can't stop it. Looking at the guild members with high morale, Zheng Mu smiled slightly and added fuel to the fire. Remember, bring back all the trophies dropped by the sticks that can be brought back. Contact us directly through the communication device, and a patrol eagle will bring back the storage backpack directly. The guild is 50 to 50 with you. Zheng Mu smiled slightly as he spoke, and suddenly two green excellent level daggers with different attributes appeared in his hand. Green snake dagger, green excellent weapon, for 10, strength 23, after using the skill backstab to hit the target, the probability of entering the tear state is 20%. Blue Flame Pattern Dagger, Green Excellent Weapon, 410, Strength 40. After attacking the target, the target will enter a sensing state, which will last for 5 minutes to see through the target's stealth skills. Under the gaze of everyone, 
as the skill ordnance transformation, was used, a brand new dagger appeared in the light of the sun array in front of everyone's eyes. Shadow Chasing Dagger, Blue Elite Level Weapon Mechanical Work by Zheng Mu, V10, Strength 41, the first skill damage to the marked target is increased by 45%. Hiss. Fortunately for Kai Xinkuan and Lin Bingyue, their equipment had been given by Zheng Mu, and they were no longer shocked by Zheng Mu's methods. But the same cannot be said for other members of the guild. Watching Zheng Mu easily combine two low-level equipment into one high-level equipment in front of them. Everyone's heart skipped a beat. The smile on Zheng Mu's face was full of bewilderment. The guild won't let you suffer. As long as you get the same type of equipment that you can use, I can help you modify it for free. Looking at the people whose breathing was obviously much heavier at this moment, this one laughed. Have you ever thought about those who entered school later and saw you all wearing purple rare level equipment? If so, do you know what to do? As soon as these words came out, more than a dozen people who were already hungry and thirsty started yelling crazily. Kill the stick and seize the treasure. Make a fortune. Boss, leave it to us. Don't talk about 50 to 50, 37, or 19. Boss, as long as you get us a set of equipment. I will treat the guild as my home. I will do whatever the family needs. Quick, 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 I saw two lonely sticks, come on, come with me. In the blink of an eye, people rushed into the goblin forest with a rustling sound. Zheng Mu looked at the red figures in the projection sand table in front of him with cold eyes. In a goblin forest, more than eight, zero, zero professionals from the Bangzi kingdom gathered together. These people unscrupulously killed monsters, upgraded and collected resources. He never thought that Zheng Mu, a lunatic, had already brought 2,000 guild members who were like bandits and had every move of them under his control. Black Claw, take your friends and go play in the forest, don't hold back. The next moment, a burst of darkness swept across the ground, but Black Claw had already cast its dark crypt and rushed into the jungle silently. Then, Zheng Mu looked at Uchiha Muzin beside him. The latter didn't need Jing Mu's instructions at all, he just nodded and rushed into the jungle. However, unlike the tasks of those guild members, the target of Uchiha Muzin, a super powerful fighter, is among these sticks, those high-level professionals who are obviously not capable of being dealt with by novice professionals. The Goblin Forest is called the Goblin Forest. Naturally, this is because the largest monster population in this forest is a group of goblins who can make various instruments and weapons. This also makes the explosion rate of weapons and equipment in the goblin forest quite high. At this moment, in a small goblin tribe, three new professionals from the Bangzi kingdom were happily picking up light balls one by one from the ground. Although they are all white and green light groups, and they are all made of materials, each of their faces is full of joy. Ha ha ha, today's harvest is simply too rich smekta, there are several guilds united, so many seniors are holding the battle, the professionals from the Dragon Kingdom simply don't dare to come in, ha ha, this place is all ours. So what if we meet the professionals from the Dragon Kingdom? The professionals from the Dragon Kingdom are as bad at fighting as their skills in bed. Ha ha ha, they have not entered the 8th grade in the global professional competition for several years. Is it stronger? Ah Shiba, I'm really not strong enough to compete with those seniors and can't go to the competition. Otherwise, I, Jin Huanha, can easily defeat three or four of those professionals from the Dragon Kingdom. Among the three people, two were dressed as warriors, and the other was carrying a bow and arrow. At this moment, after taking care of the monsters around him, his voice was so unscrupulous. They didn't notice at all that around them, several figures had silently surrounded them. Among them, the Terminator has silently taken off two electromagnetic grenades from his waist. After a few people made eye contact, a B-level assassin team member immediately sneaked in and touched the position behind the archer. Pfft. Ah. The assassin who suddenly appeared and struck a deadly blow immediately jumped the three of them. However, before they could react, the assassin suddenly threw two projectiles. The skill smoke bomb explodes directly on the spot. When the three people lost their sight in embarrassment, two electromagnetic grenades were thrown directly into the crowd. Boom. Click. Li Wang Zhao. 
Then the other people who were hiding here also took action one after another, and the long-range attacks were directed towards the people who were in the electromagnetic state and could not move. One minute later. Several people looked at the three people who were turned into pieces by them, but they looked at each other, their eyes full of excitement. It's great. It's so great. Ha ha ha. Hurry up and take a look at their storage backpacks. Damn these damn sticks. They dare to say that our men from the Dragon Kingdom are not good enough. Now let's see who is not good. Damn it. This guy actually has several pieces of equipment. It seems that he has been in here for a long time. Situations like this can be seen everywhere in the Goblin Forest. The goals of these guild members are not just these sticks. When they see monsters on the map that are alone and can be easily dealt with, they will take action one after another. So at this moment, although Zheng Mu is lying on the soft bed, enjoying Mira Jane's massage service, the experience value column on the panel has begun to advance slowly. You assisted in killing the crossbow goblin 423, and gained 69 experience points. You helped kill the Vinantler deer 421, and gained 47 experience points. You helped kill the ice ruler toad 424, and gained 109 experience points. You assist. Although the experience value of this pen is not much, Jing Mu is in a pretty good mood. There was a knock on the door, and Mary and Rose walked in carrying several storage backpacks. Lord Master, these are the first batch of trophies that have been sent back. According to your request, the requirements of the recipients of the trophies are written in them. Seeing the storage backpack that was obviously stained with blood, the corners of Zheng Mu's mouth couldn't help but curl up slightly. It's just a matter of using ordnance modification. To him, this is not a big deal at all. However, these guild members had already begun to make gains less than half an hour after entering the forest. Where are you going? It won't be long before I go to your place to book a venue. Chapter, 94 Abuji, we have been here for almost a month. Does the place you mentioned really exist? If this continues, the two guilds Shandao and Tongyun may not be able to wait any longer. A young man in shining golden armor followed a middle-aged man with a helpless expression. Reminded quietly. The man looked back at him, with obvious hatred in his eyes. All day long, there are various guilds that drop in, including the Tongyun guild. Without them, wouldn't our Tailong guild be able to operate in this goblin forest? Chen Doxian, you are a descendant of me, Chen Tongmin. You are the future heir of Tai Long Guild. Can you show some momentum and momentum that you should have? When the young man named Chen Doxian heard his father's words, he immediately shrank his neck. Chen Tongmin's mere glare gave people the aura of a fierce tiger descending from the mountain. However, looking at his useless son at this moment, Chen Tongmin felt a headache. It seems that teaching his son to have the courage that a strong man should have is more difficult than creating the Tailong Guild from a small and low-income group, and developing the Tailong Guild into a second-rate top guild in the country, or even challenging the first-rate guild. Looking at Chen Doxian with his head lowered and looking like a doormat, he couldn't help but curse Chi Ba in anger. To be honest, Chen Tongmin cares more about his career and strength than any other family. If it weren't for Chen Doxian being an S-class space inspector, he would have huge potential. Such waste, even if it hadn't hit the wall back then, would have been buried in the soil by now. Listening to the nagging curses from his father, Chen Doxian continued to follow him silently. However, the resentment and anger in his eyes were not noticed by Chen Tongmin who was walking in front. They made this trip with great fanfare, and even united with two other second-rate guilds in Bangzi country. Their purpose was to find the treasure that Chen Tongmin accidentally obtained from a secret realm. 990. A treasure said to represent the crystallization of the wisdom of the Goblin Clan. However, the Goblin Forest is neither too big nor too small. Seven or eight thousand people have been searching in the Goblin Forest for a month, but they haven't found any clues. At this point, not to mention the other two guilds who were brought in to get a share of the pie, even the members of Tai Long Guild had many complaints. At this moment, although teams are still wandering in the Goblin Forest, their goal has already changed from finding the entrance to the secret realm to looking for monsters to kill and upgrade. 
Aksiba, how long have you been walking here? They are all a group of low-level monsters that are not enough to fill your teeth. They have wasted a full month here. With ten uses, we can at least gain a lot. A heavily armored young man chopped the goblin warrior who rushed in front of him into pieces with a single blow. Before the opponent could stand up, he swept the sword across his hand and instantly defeated him. Several companions who were collecting trophies on the side also sighed helplessly when they heard the man's complaints. This is the periphery after all. Ordinary members like us can only move around in this area. The monsters around level 30 are all in the core area. There are seven people in a team. Two heavily armed warriors, two marksmen, plus an assassin, a mage and a priest. The average level is still around 423. In the area outside the goblin forest, there is no need to worry about any danger. And precisely because of this, everyone is so unscrupulous. However, what they don't know at this moment is. At this moment, with them as the center, within a radius of more than 100 meters, they had never thought that the team of professionals from the Dragon Kingdom had quietly completed the siege. A level tomb keeper Hang Shanha looked at the sand table projected on his watch. The yellow figures representing their own people had surrounded these seven small towns. He immediately said to the T-800 beside him. Let them be careful. These seven guys are not low level. They should act in sync. Soon, the voice of Hang Shanha came from the mouths of the T-800s in other teams. As everyone confirmed, assassin-type professionals immediately began to quietly approach the seven people. There were six assassins, but their targets were only two. Priests and mages among the seven. As for the others, as the encirclement shrinks, the mages and archers in their team have locked onto these guys. Be prepared for a sudden and indiscriminate bombardment at any time. Just as the seven people were picking up the loot on the scene without any precautions, two figures suddenly appeared in the team, behind the mage and priest. Ah! Caught off guard, the assassin's high critical hit damage directly caused the two people's health bar to drop by one level. The sudden change instantly aroused the alertness of the two soldiers and the marksmen. Enemy attack. The leader yelled and was about to run towards the two of them first. However, the next moment, a large vine suddenly appeared on the grass beneath his feet. The slightly bulky body staggered instantly, and at this moment, whistling sounds came from all directions. Fireballs, stone spears, poison arrows, etc. A variety of skills instantly overwhelmed several of them. Priest, activate the healing aura. The severe pain and the fear of having his health bar cut off in half instantly made the captain yell hurriedly. However, another familiar scream came. There was a snap and the sound of two bodies falling to the ground, causing several people's expressions to change wildly. In the haziness, he saw that apart from the two assassins who escaped with just one blow, there were other things hidden at the scene. The health bars of the mage and priest in the team have disappeared. Quickly retreat. Break out to the core area. The captain yelled, but at this moment, a more violent attack hit their heads. The captain only had time to see a screaming, ferocious head rushing toward his door with the sound of a ghost crying or a wolf howling. Then, a burst of huge scarlet energy exploded. Boom. Ha ha ha. Let me ask you, am I good at this skill? I give my skills to my face. Let alone a heavily armored warrior, even an armored warrior will kneel in front of me. After the battle, Hang Shanha ran out of the bushes with a proud look on his face. Everyone looked at the captain whose upper body was blown off by Hang Shanha's explosive head, and shook their heads. Tragic, too tragic. Because it is the highest level among several people, it is also the existence with the highest defense power. This captain definitely withstood their highest firepower output. Clean the battlefield, let's retreat quickly, there are already sticks coming towards us. Three days passed in a flash. As the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild became more and more proficient in this kind of tactics and fighting methods, and became more and more proficient in controlling their own skills, a large number of guild professionals lost contact, which finally attracted the attention of various guild management. And when they confirmed the number of missing members, they almost collapsed on the ground in fear. President, there are 317 people. 
a total of 317 of our members have lost contact within three days. According to the previous arrangements, they all lost contact outside the Goblin Forest. President, our Tai Long Guild has lost contact with 177 people, and they are also on the periphery. 184 people from our Tongyun Guild have lost contact. Under a towering tree, when Chen Tong Min and three other guild presidents heard the reports from their subordinates, Li Shundao, the president of the Shundao Guild who had suffered the most losses, suddenly burst into anger. Axi. Chen Tong Min, what is going on here? Is this your trap? You deliberately lured us to this ghost place with your non existent treasure. In the end, you secretly wanted to destroy us and then annex us. Let the two of us make Tai Long Guild a first class guild. Li Xuandao's words instantly made the atmosphere at the scene dangerous. The professionals whose names belonged to different guilds all became wary. He moved his position slowly and without leaving a trace. Shi Yunzai, the president of Tongyun Guild, also had cold eyes. President Chen, I also hope you can give me a reasonable explanation as to why all this is happening. In just three days, we were able to lose so many people. You must know that these people are all assigned to the periphery. They are basically monsters around level 20. It is impossible to cause so many, and it is a collective loss of contact. Is all of this really what President Li said? and it's all part of your long-planned plan to annex us. Chen Tongmin's face was also extremely gloomy. Although he was sitting where he was, he looked like a ferocious tiger grinding its teeth and sucking blood. He frowned and contemplated all the possibilities. However, after thinking for a long time, he could only shake his head. This matter was not done by us Tai Long. Don't forget, we lost a lot of people. With this sudden loss of contact, I guess that the outer areas of the goblin forest. Maybe some monster has appeared that we don't know about. What are the monsters coming from other areas? Chen Tong Min's words made Li Shundao and Li Shundao very dissatisfied, but what the other party said was not wrong. Tai Long Guild also suffered a lot of losses, and he was not even the one who suffered the least loss in the master's family. It was precisely because of this that they did not choose to break up directly. I will ask my eldest son Doshian to lead people to explore the surrounding area. With Doshian's professional ability, even if he finds an invincible monster, he will be able to evacuate safely and bring the news back to us. After hearing this, the Shundao Guild and the Tongyun Guild finally chose to wait for the time being. Although the scope of the accident was close to the direction of Longguo, none of the three people thought about Longguo. For people whose status reaches their level, they still know more or less everything about the upper echelons. Although the specific situation is not clear. But they know that the Dragon Kingdom itself cannot be saved recently and is already struggling to support itself. It is simply impossible to separate strong men at this time to deal with these second-rate guilds from Bangzi country. The fact that the three guilds asked their members to shrink inward was discovered by the Wheel of Truth almost on the same day. Hey, it seems we did it a little too hard. We obviously scared them. Forget it, you are the one with the most killing skills, TNND, aren't you just bullying us warriors who don't have powerful long-range skills? That's right, you should leave some soup for us after all. On top of a big tree, members of the Wheel of Truth Guild, who had just finished a small siesta, were full of energy, laughing and scolding each other. Now they have realized the joy Mu had in the bone-swallowing desert. Not to mention taking hot baths, eating sumptuous meals, and being served by maids. Just the fact that they now personally experience a mechanical creation standing guard and sleeping peacefully is enough to make them excited. Just when these people were discussing whether to continue going in depth. Stand. The T-800 under the tree suddenly spoke. The familiar voice of Leng Binyue came from it. If you hear the sound, immediately follow the T-800 to join us. On the outskirts of the goblin forest, more than 200 people soon gathered in the thatched huts of several goblin tribes that had been cleared out. It seemed that all the teams operating nearby were here. Captain Lang, is there any big reason why you called us all here? Lang Binyue nodded, and in front of everyone, he opened the map detected by Patrol Eagle and zoomed in on a place. Everyone saw only dozens of red figures, coming from the goblin forest. The core area of the forest is shit. 
coming towards them. Classmate He Shan Yun just came back from there. According to her investigation, in addition to some high-level professionals, there is also an S-level professional in the stick this time. As soon as these words came out, everyone took a deep breath. Then, strong murderous intent appeared in everyone's eyes. S-class professionals, in any country, are the ones who are focused on training, and when I think of the appearance of those veterans I saw a few days ago. Everyone present sentenced this team, especially the S-class professional among them, to death. The command of this operation undoubtedly fell on Leng Binyue. Just when Chen Doxian was leading people to carefully explore the situation outside the Goblin Forest, a large invisible net had been quietly opened towards them. When Zheng Mu heard that Leng Binyue and the others were going to deal with an S-level professional, he also became interested. In the dark of night, Chen Doxian and others wandered around the perimeter for most of the day without any results, which made Chen Doxian's face extremely ugly. Appa, don't worry. It's possible that the monster has left. Didn't the president say it before? It might be. A good-looking professional just stepped forward to comfort him, but Chen Doxian's eyes suddenly turned fierce. He suddenly stepped forward and grabbed the other person's neck. Aksaba, I think I told you more than once, don't you mention that old thing in front of me? You bastard, if your brain is useless, then you might as well let me help you. Pick up. The woman was pinched by Chen Doxian's neck in pain and lifted up. When she saw that the other party actually pulled out the scimitar from her waist, she shook her head in fright. The surrounding guild members turned a blind eye to this. The sound of crackling bonfires came, and at this time, the professionals on duty seemed to sense something. Hey, do you think Zero One is too quiet? Suddenly, everyone present looked shocked and were about to do something. Next moment. Pfft. A round head flew up, and before they could turn around, a beast with its head shining with black metal light suddenly rushed out from the surrounding darkness. Roar. A mage professional, who was using a defensive shield that had not been completed yet, was bitten on the shoulder by two monsters, one on the left and one on the right. Accompanied by a stabbing sound. The two arms were immediately removed directly, causing severe pain and an abnormal state of blood loss. This level 431 mage instantly lost his combat effectiveness. Aksiba, these are the monsters, everyone is gathering towards me. Chen Doxian threw the professional in his hand aside, roared, and slashed out the huge black claw in front of him with the scimitar with silver light in his hand. However, the next moment, black claw suddenly fell down and fell directly into the Minister of Darkness above the ground. When Chen Doxian was stunned, he suddenly appeared from behind. Boom! A fierce claw slapped the opponent's body, and the latter screamed and rolled on the spot. However, just as he was about to stand up fiercely, in the sudden darkness, in addition to those unknown monsters, silhouettes suddenly appeared one after another. The female professional who was thrown out by him just stood up, and suddenly a bloody blade as wide as a palm came out of her chest. In the darkness, a hot female figure appeared behind the man. However, at this moment, Chen Doxian no longer cared about whether she was beautiful or not. He looked in astonishment at his subordinates who were overwhelmed by the skills shot out from the surrounding darkness in the blink of an eye, and immediately made a smart move. Run. If you don't run, you will die. Chapter, 95. Think it and do it. At this moment, I don't know the identity of the enemy at all. The most important thing is that such enemies are everywhere. Skills suddenly hit them from all directions. It was as if they had expected them to be here and had laid an ambush in advance. The skill is released with precision. Chen Doxian saw with his own eyes that even the shield warriors on his side, who were level 432, did not even have time to figure out where the enemy was. The next moment, his body was hit by more than a dozen exploding arrows coming from all directions. Boom! The person disappeared, and the big shield was blown into the air. This scene was so frightening that Chen Doxian broke into a cold sweat. He didn't dare to hesitate at all and immediately used his skills. Sky Gate Instantly, a milky white light door appeared in front of him. No. Stop him. A voice came, and Chen Doxian was so frightened that he rolled directly into the light door. Boom. 
The moment the light door disappeared, Chen Doxian looked back and saw an empty rock hand. Cold sweat broke out instantly. The faint sound of fighting came from far away, but Chen Doxian let out a long sigh of relief at this moment. Just like what his father said, in his profession, let alone other things, there is more than just escape skills. Aksiba, that voice just now these bastards are actually from the Dragon Kingdom. Damn bastards, they dare to attack us. All of them will die. Chen Doxian's face was full of anger. If he hadn't been fast enough, he would have run away when he saw something was wrong. Then today I have to explain it directly. However, now I can go back and do business. Thinking of this, Chen Doxian was just about to get up from the ground, but he was shocked to find that at some point, a pair of shiny leather shoes appeared in front of him. A cold but magnetic voice came from above. The host has prepared such a lively welcome ceremony. As a guest, wouldn't it be a bit rude for you to leave now? Chen Doxian slowly raised his head in shock. They happened to be looking at each other with a pair of scarlet eyes with three black Magatama eyes. The next moment, a line of information suddenly appeared on the panel. You have received zero two hits from the skill magic shackle technique and entered a continuous silent state, which cannot be lifted unless you take the initiative. Chen Doxian, who was just about to stand up and fight back, his eyes widened in the next moment. Cold sweat broke out from his body. He actually just looked at this unknown guy and immediately fell into silence. And it is still a terrifying abnormal state that cannot be eliminated actively. Seeing Chen Doxian who had instantly lost his fighting power and was caught in his hands like a chicken, the look of contempt in Uchiha Musen's eyes flashed away. Is this the S-class professional that the Lord's friends are talking about? He really doesn't have any of the attributes of a strong man. Such a guy, let alone giving him an S-level career, even an SS-level career, in Uchiha Musen's heart, is not as good as one of Zheng Mu's fingers. On the other side, the battle on Ling Bingyue's side ended soon, but everyone's expressions were surprisingly ugly. It's all my fault. I didn't expect that that person's S-level profession was actually a space-based profession. Now that the other party has escaped, we are afraid that we will be exposed soon. There were a few drops of blood from the enemy on He Shang Yun's pretty face, and there was even more blood on the short knife in his hand. Hearing this, Lang Bingyue hurriedly waved her hands and was about to say some comforting words. But a familiar voice suddenly came from behind. Oh, this is so lively. Looking back, I saw Jing Mu who seemed to have just taken a shower and was wearing a slightly loose moon-white pajamas. Even though they already knew the opponent's fighting style, everyone was still speechless when they saw Jing Mu who was so unorganized and even obviously bored. However, when he saw a familiar figure next to Jing Mu, Uchiha Mukai was holding the bag in his hand. But everyone's faces immediately showed smiles. Jing Mu looked at Leng Bingyue and the others with a smile. How's it going? Without you brother Mu, it really wouldn't work, right? The stinking look made Ling Bingyue and Jiang Lanlan roll their eyes, but He Shang Yun ignored them and flew past him. Ha ha ha, great, now we directly captured an S-class professional from Bangzi alive. Brother Mu, you are simply too strong. The soft touch made Jing Mu, who had just taken a shower, cough dryly. Although the nightgown is large, the size is there, and if anything happens. I couldn't hide it even if I wanted to. Kai Shinkuen couldn't care about this. He looked at Chindoshian in Uchiha Musen's hands and asked with a frown. Boss, how should we deal with this? Isn't it a bit too cheap to kill him? Hearing this, Chindoshian, who was already pale, suddenly broke into a cold sweat. He wanted to say something, but under the control of Uchiha Musen, he couldn't even open his mouth. In addition to praying over and over again in my heart that my stern father, who I once hated so much, would quickly discover the situation here, there was no other way. Seeing the eyes of everyone looking over, Zheng Mu glanced at the trembling Chen Doxian. So many of our seniors have become like that because of these bastards, and how many of our elite professionals from the Dragon Kingdom have died in the battle with them. Kill him huh, it is indeed too cheap. Zheng Mu smiled slightly. Just now, the Red Queen had quickly found out the identity of this S-class professional, which quickly formed a plan in Jing Mu's mind. Letting the rest of the guild move freely, 
Jinmu took this guy back to the base vehicle. Although the other party is a professional in the space system, the inside of the base vehicle itself is a special space. No matter how much this guy jumps, he will never be able to escape. Just after Achiha Muzin released the opponent's restraint, Chindoshian hurriedly knelt in front of Zheng Mu in a panic. Even though I knelt down to a guy from the Dragon Kingdom, my heart was filled with anger and shame. But at this moment, compared with his glorious future as an S-class professional, these are nothing. Chindoshian rubbed his hands together in a praying posture. This, my lord, please don't kill me. I, I have never killed anyone from the Dragon Kingdom. I am very helpless. My family belongs to the Tai Long Guild, and my father is the president of the Tai Long Guild. If you have any requests, feel free to ask. Please let me go. Even though he had a celebrity translating for him, Chindoshian Smekta over and over again still made Jing Mu's eyes look dangerous. He waved his hand and interrupted the other party directly, with a vague smile on his face. He asked a question that confused Chindoshian directly. Do you want to inherit the Tai Long Guild as soon as possible? Be called the president by others? Well, what? Chindoshian was trembling. He had no idea what Cheng Mu was planning to do at this moment, but he looked at Cheng Mu with a somewhat cold look, and Uchiha Muzin beside him, who was about to draw his sword. He nodded his head in an instant, and was so frightened by the strong pressure from Uchiha Muzin that tears came out of his eyes. I think. I want to be the president. Whatever you say, sir, I will do. Please don't kill me, please. After hearing this, a happy smile finally appeared on his face. Looking at Uchiha Muzin aside, he asked. There should be no problem in controlling this guy, right? Uchiha Muzin glanced disdainfully at Chindoshian who was kneeling on the ground, and nodded. Don't worry, Master Lord, even if he escapes to the ends of the world, as long as you nod, I can make him endure the most terrifying pain in the world, and I can take his life at any time. Zheng Mu nodded, said nothing, and walked out of the room. What are you going to do? Spare your life. Spare your life. Chen Doshian's heart-rending wails of pain disappeared instantly as the door behind him closed. Zheng Mu looked at Lin Bingyue who was curious and wanted to look inside. The latter wanted to know what Zheng Mu planned to do with this S-level guy, so he followed him back. However, looking at the slim Lin Bingyue, Zheng Mu's eyes began to look a little weird. Sister Bingyue, if I remember correctly, I haven't forgiven you for the last time you led someone to arrest someone, right? Lang Bingyue was stunned for a moment, looking at Zheng Mu who was pressing closer and pressing herself against the corner. You have already thought of what the other party wants to do. You, you already have Shang Yun, you. She wanted to struggle to escape, but her body stood motionless. She wanted to say something, but Zheng Mu interrupted her with a chuckle. But men are greedy after all. At dawn the next day, when Zheng Mu walked out of Leng Bingyue's room, Achiha Muzin was leaning on the edge of the corridor, closing his eyes and concentrating. He didn't know what the meaning of this posture was for a mechanical creature. Lord Lord, everything goes well. Even if he is asked to die, he will agree. Seeing the weird smile on Achiha Muzin's lips, Zheng Mu could almost imagine that he was so happy and happy last night, as if he had landed in heaven. What is Chindoshian going through next door? When the sound of the door ringing came, as soon as Zheng Mu came in, he saw Chindoshian who quickly knelt on the ground with a plop and looked down on him. Following Achiha Muzin's thought, a burst of rich black energy immediately emerged from the latter's body the next moment. No, no, sir. Please, I will be obedient. I can do whatever you ask me to do. Looking at Chindoshian, who was so frightened that he almost lost control on the spot when he saw the black energy coming out of his body, Zheng Mu waved his hand, but did not let Achiha Muzin really arouse this destruction. Tell me, you guys stayed in the goblin forest for a month. What were you doing? Hearing this, Chindoshian didn't hesitate at all. He told everything about what his father was looking for on the spot without any details. The treasure map only records a general direction. We haven't found the specific location yet. When I heard that there were some top secret treasures of the goblin clan in the goblin forest. Zheng Mu's eyes suddenly brightened up, 
it seemed that Shi Shi could bring some unexpected surprises to him. Zheng Mu looked at Qin Doxian kneeling in front of him with a smile, and squatted down slightly. I will let you go back, but after you go back, you will say that you found something suspected to be the Goblin Clan's secret treasure in the periphery, and take everyone to the same place as possible. As long as you can bring people to the location I mentioned, we can help you send your dear father on his way. By then, you will be a member of Tai Long Guild. President. When Chen Doxian heard this, besides quickly kowtow and thank him, what else could he say? Soon, when Leng Bingyue woke up leisurely, Zheng Mu had asked Chen Doxian to go back and report to his dear president with a photo of the base vehicle. You let him go now. When Leng Bingyue heard that Zheng Mu actually let go of the S-level professional he had obtained, Leng Bingyue sat up anxiously. Subsequently. Hiss. Feeling the pain like muscle strain coming from her body after excessive exercise, Leng Bingyue's pretty face turned pale in an instant, and when she saw Zheng Mu standing aside with his chest in his arms, he smiled. After groaning. Suddenly he was so angry that he threw the pillow next to him. Thinking of the absurdity of last night and the absurd words that should not have come from her mouth, Ling Bingyue only felt that she hoped that the world would be destroyed soon. Fortunately, Zheng Mu was just joking and asked him to bring the prepared breakfast. Don't worry, that Chen Doxian. From now on, if I tell him to go east, he will not dare to go west. His life is already in my hands. Zheng Mu smiled proudly and handed the spoon in his hand to the other person's mouth. Such an intimate behavior made Leng Bingyue's face turn red. How are you going to tell my mother about our affairs? The red date and almond soup that was just right in temperature was slightly sweet, but Leng Bingyue asked in a quiet voice. Zheng Mu smiled faintly. 660 say what you have to say. Leng Bingyue was startled, then curled her lips, scumbag. In the core area of the goblin forest, when Chen Doxian was panting and excited, he found his father and handed the photo in his hand to him. If Zheng Mu were present, he would definitely give him a thumbs up for his acting skills. Abji, come on, take a look at this thing. Is it the secret treasure of the goblins you're looking for? I found it outside the goblin forest. In addition to this big guy, there are many more. Something like a mechanical monster. They are too strong. Seeing Chen Doxian's embarrassed look, Chen Tongmin didn't think much about it at all. Although I was very sad about the loss of those guild members, I still immediately informed the members of the other two guilds. Four to five thousand people swarmed, led by Chen Doxian, and headed towards an area on the outskirts of the Goblin Forest. Along the way, Chen Tongmin eagerly urged everyone to speed up. The fierceness seemed to be afraid that others would take away the meal that should belong to them, which made Chen Doxian's eyes behind him full of resentment. This old guy really doesn't give any face to me as his son. Shiba, since you are so anxious to die, what reason do I have for not agreeing? While Chen Doxian quickened his pace, he was thinking about how Mu and the others were going to get rid of so many people at once. And without them knowing it at all. At this moment, the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild in the Goblin Forest were all moving towards the place where they would cut off their retreat under the remote control of Zheng Mu. Outside the Goblin Forest, there were bursts of mechanical sounds. The firepower system torrent that once shocked the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild has once again entered a state of readiness. The fast-moving members of the Wheel of Truth Guild in the Goblin Forest. When they saw the real-time sand table map projected on their wrists, and when they saw the thousands of red figures heading towards the place where Zheng Mu said the attack was, their eyes showed deep excitement. Color. It's so cool, this is so damn cool. If we follow the boss and kill these damn little Shiba in one go, we will definitely be bringing glory to the country. Ha ha ha, I seem to have seen what I look like in purple. If the president of Tai Long Guild knew that his filial son was taking him to the execution ground, I don't know what his expression would be. Indeed, my filial son is so filial to me. This is indeed something Shao Shiba can do, ha ha ha. Everyone was talking a lot, as if they had seen the groundwashing explosion. The members of the Bangzi Guild Guild who originally thought they had found the treasure, all looked at the filial son Chen Doxian. Betrayed. He was sent to the sky by the base's terrifying firepower. 
at the same time, outside the goblin forest. In the control room of the base, amid the melodious and romantic music, Jing Mu was hugging the blushing Ling Bingyue and dancing slightly. The two swayed slightly, looking at each other. One hand is resting on a red button. Chapter, 96 Melodious classical music echoed in the control room. The Red Queen on the side has completely lost sight of the couple in front of her. After completing the transformation, Ling Bingyue seemed to be a completely different person, and she also chose to cooperate very gently with some of Zheng Mu's actions. When the invisible breath of death filled the goblin forest. At this moment, the two people in the base car drank a glass of wine without shame. Finally, the Red Queen felt that some parts of her body were about to be contaminated by the sour smell between the two. The sound of beeping suddenly sounded. Several people turned their heads and saw that in the light curtain in the control room at this moment, the red light spots representing thousands of Shao Shiba finally gradually reached the strike range they determined. Huh, let these guys pay back part of the interest for the time being. Click. What's going on? Where are the things? In a huge forest clearing, Chen Tongmin, who was still excited at first, was stunned when he saw the empty space in front of him. People were hurriedly searching around. However, let alone the secret treasure of the goblin clan, I searched around and found not even a low-level ordinary goblin. Chen Tongmin frowned and looked at the photo in his hand. Although it was unclear whether it was a mechanical product that was obviously not simple, where in the goblin forest it was. But the variety of the surrounding trees is very certain, it is the goblin forest. On the side, Li Shundao and Shi Yun, whose smiles also disappeared, also walked over and frowned. What do you mean? President Chen, our time is very precious. Now a month has passed, but there is no trace of the secret treasure you talked about. Are you playing tricks on us? Chen Tongmin frowned, looked at his son beside him with fierce eyes, and grabbed him. Shaking the photo in his hand. You brat, are you really sure? Look again, is this really here? Didn't it mean that everyone else was in danger? Didn't it mean that a fierce battle broke out? Where is the body? Where are the traces of the battle? Looking at his father, who became more and more excited as he talked, and suddenly slapped him in front of everyone, he was caught off guard, and with a snap, Chen Doxian felt a burning pain on his face. All the resentment towards his father in his heart finally exploded at this moment. Where is the secret treasure? Where is the secret treasure? Do you still have my son in the eyes of this crazy old man? Asaba. The crazy roar not only stunned the surrounding guild members, but also stunned Li Shundao and Shi Yunzai, who were about to stop and break up the fight. What? Chen Tongmin also had a look of disbelief on his face. Looking at his son who suddenly felt strange in front of him, the vicious look in his eyes sent chills down his spine. However, Chen Doxian no longer cares about what happens next. After today, President Chen Tongmin, President Li Shundao, or President Shi Yun, as long as those people from the Dragon Kingdom can really provide him with enough power, he can directly integrate the remaining power of the three guilds into one together. Become the president of a guild yourself. IMS class. Do you, an old man, understand this? IMS class. You have been pointing fingers at me all day long and scolding me in front of so many people. Do you think I am just like you, the kind of B-level brat who is not looked down upon by others? I'm S-class, why aren't I allowed to inherit the guild? Why do you have to stop me from doing anything? If you, old guy, die early, I, Chen Doxian, can definitely make Taishi Guild the strongest guild in Bangzi country. Go to hell, old guy. Chen Tongmin. The scene was completely silent, and everyone stared blankly at the crazy Chen Doxian. What these people don't know is that they are also watching the scene of the puppy biting the old dog with gusto, and there are other members of the Wheel of Truth Guild who have blocked their way back to Bangzi country. He 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 he, that old guy was fooled by his filial son. Ha 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 ha, look at him, he is completely stupid. Ha ha ha, this old guy is probably thinking whether Chindoshian drank too much. S-level professionals really shouldn't be treated like this. There's something wrong with this old Shiba education method. No matter if he has any problems or not, old dogs and puppies are still dogs, and none of them are good things. 
If the boss hadn't said that keeping that guy would be useful, otherwise, I really want to see all of them blown up into the sky. Just as everyone was talking about it, bursts of screams suddenly came from the distant sky, and the sound came from far to near. When Chen Doxian heard this sound, he suddenly woke up. He looked at Chen Tongmin who looked confused and still held the photo in his hand. Old man, an adult asked me to ask you a question before you die. Have you ever seen justice fall from heaven? His son, who was feeling extremely wrong, suddenly said such meaningful words, coupled with the sharp sounds in the sky, Chen Tongmin's expression suddenly changed wildly. Treason. What on earth have you done? However, at this moment, a white light door suddenly opened behind Chen Doxian, and after he entered it, it quickly closed. Vaguely, Chen Tongmin and others also heard words such as have a good journey. Zhao Zhao, Mr. President, something is coming from the sky. Boo. Boom boom boom. Hundreds of artillery shells, aided by the patrol eagle's reconnaissance, accurately enveloped everyone present. Violent ground tremors, accompanied by terrifying explosions, instantly swept through the entire goblin forest. It directly alarmed all the professionals in the small town in Dragon Kingdom. Chen Doxian, who had just used his skills to escape from the center of the explosion, felt the roaring wind on his face and the violent shaking of the earth. It felt like my heart had stopped at this moment. He was trembling and saying something unintelligible. Wu was rolling and crawling towards a place away from the explosion. However, it is clear that such attacks have not stopped. Boo hoo. Chapter, 97. After a total of five rounds of groundwashing bombings, Zheng Mu looked at the explosion range, scanned by the patrol eagle, and concluded that no one survived. Directly order the people from the Wheel of Truth Guild to clean up the scene. And when Chen Doxian staggered here, he saw the bombing site that had turned into a big crater. Except for some scattered equipment and storage backpacks that were still shining with light. There was not a single person present. This, how is this possible? When Zheng Mu came here with Lang Bingyue. Looking around, there are guild members everywhere who are busy digging in the soil and looking for storage backpacks. In the open space on the side, storage backpacks are now piled three to four meters high. Boss is here. Boss, we sent it. Ha ha ha. President, you are so fierce. There are still five to six thousand Shaoshiba, and they were directly blasted to the point where not even a scrap was left. There are so many storage backpacks that we can't even carry them. Listening to everyone's chatter of surprise, Zheng Mu smiled and made a downward movement. In an instant, the scene was quiet. We quickly packed up our things and rested for two days in a nearby town. After that, we were going to do something even more exciting than today. As soon as these words came out, everyone's breathing shortened. More exciting than today. They had only been in the goblin forest for a few days, but they had already killed six to seven thousand stick professionals. Among them, these people have also contributed a lot. It is not an exaggeration to say that each of them has initially possessed the murderous intent on the battlefield. Seeing that Zheng Mu was unwilling to reveal more, all 027 people could only suppress their inner excitement and devoted themselves to collecting the trophies one by one. When Zheng Mu and his group came out of the goblin forest, put away the base vehicle and returned to the city, they found that everyone here was nervously looking at the situation in the goblin forest. Seeing Zheng Mu and the others appear, Several professionals immediately asked slightly worriedly. Classmates, what happened in the goblin forest just now? Zheng Mu and others all shook their heads, joking. Could it be that they had killed six or seven thousand sticks, and they could still tell them directly? Hey, what on earth are those damn Bangzi country professionals doing inside? No one will come to attack our small town, right? Hey, who knows, our place is too remote after all and some of the garrison was even withdrawn some time ago. The chatter behind him reached Cheng Mu's ears, making him more determined to take the next action. Night falls. Several hotels in the city were directly booked by them, none of them were short of money, and even small places did not treat themselves badly. At the same time, in Cheng Mu's room, he was performing ordnance modification, over and over again. Standing next to him, Uchiha Musen looked helpless and innocent, leaning on the wall. 
If someone could see his health bar at this time, they would find that this guy's health bar is undergoing a tug of war. With his skill extremely rapid regeneration, even if he only has the last bit of durability left, he can quickly return to full health after the one hour skill cooldown. The terrifying performance has not yet been demonstrated in battle, but now it has become the most convenient super health pack for Zheng Mu. Tifa and Mary Rose were released by him, and the weapons and equipment he synthesized were delivered to the people lining up outside. The harvest this time is in accordance with the previous agreement. Half of it will belong to the guild, in fact, it belongs to him as the president. The remaining half belongs to these people themselves, plus Zheng Mu also helps them synthesize equipment for free. Almost no one present felt that they had suffered a loss in this matter. On the contrary, Lang Bingyue and He Shang Yun on the side looked worried. Zheng Mu, why don't you take a break? Are you really not tired? He Shang Yun breathed out the fragrance of orchid. After hearing this, Zheng Mu thought for a while and lay directly on the other party's lap. When you say this, I feel really tired. Seeing Zheng Mu's mean expression, He Shang Yun's cheeks flew into the air, and Lang Bingyue couldn't help but pinch his leg. But then she looked at Cheng Mu's head and was gently kneaded. He Shang Yun. Gritting his teeth, he silently placed the opponent's leg on his own, and with a pair of weak, boneless hands, began to press it awkwardly. To be honest, the other person's rubbing action made him not feel the slightest relief. Instead, he had the inexplicable illusion that he had become a vegetative person lying on the bed. When Zheng Mu finished synthesizing a wave of equipment and everyone went down to rest, it was already two or three in the morning. Let Uchiha Muzin drag the frightened Chindoshian in. As soon as the latter entered the door, he immediately knelt on the ground with a plop. Zheng Mu didn't scare him anymore. Now that he has been controlled by Uchiha Muzin's breath of destruction, it is absolutely impossible to get rid of him in the future. Given that the opponent is an S-level space inspector with many space skills, he will definitely have a place among the high-level professionals in Bangzi country in the future. And I only need to give the other party enough support. The future Chindoshian will definitely be much more valuable than a dead person. As long as there are other people in your Tailong guild that you can't control, count them over the past few days. I will ask Wuhan to accompany you and secretly help you get rid of those who are dissatisfied with you. Then I will give you the requirements are very simple. Within one month, annex the participating Shandao and Tongyun guilds. When Chindoshian heard this, his face was immediately filled with gratitude and enthusiasm. Bow towards Zheng Mu. Thank you for your cultivation. If you have anything to do in Bangzi country from now on, just leave it to your subordinates. Although it is not clear how strong Uchiha Muzin is at full strength, at least in Chindoshian's view, Helping him unify the three guilds is definitely a handholding. Afterwards, Chen Doshian hurriedly took something out of his arms. Sir, this is the treasure map of the secret realm that you asked me to find. There was only such a thing in the secret realm at the beginning, and the specific location was not clear. Zheng Mu nodded and waved his hand to let the other person leave. Just let the other person go. But Zheng Mu looked at the stars outside the window, not feeling sleepy at all and thought for a while, taking Uchiha Muzin with him and quietly entering the goblin forest again without anyone knowing. The patrol eagle was released and began to conduct a reconnaissance scan of the entire goblin forest. This kind of thing may be a troublesome thing for other people, but for Zheng Mu who has a patrolling eagle and a red queen, it is a piece of cake. In just five minutes, the red queen had already mapped out a rough range for Zheng Mu. Then this range continued to shrink after the patrol eagles focused scanning. Ten minutes later, looking at the ordinary tree in front of him, Zheng Mu's eyes flashed. There is no need for the Uchiha Muzin around him to take action. The skill conservation double was used, and at the next moment, all his strength was focused on him and he punched the tree trunk in front of him like a wolf. Boom! A huge tree hole appeared in front of Zheng Mu, and inside the tree hole, there was a golden treasure box. Zheng Mu raised his eyebrows, and as soon as he put his hand on the treasure box, the next moment, in a burst of golden light, the treasure box opened automatically. Congratulations on discovering the secret treasure of Heaven the Essence Treasure Box of the Goblin Clan. Since you currently have Tiandao Points 3, three items inside the treasure box will be automatically extracted for you. 
Looking at the golden treasure chest, Zheng Mu froze on the spot. What the hell? The Tian Dao point is actually used here. Previously, Zheng Mu had cleared two secret realms and killed the Golden Glory Insect Mother in the Bone Swallowing Desert, burning a total of three Heavenly Dao points. I never knew what the use of this thing was. Since the difficulty of his own energy secret realm didn't seem to be easy, he didn't even dare to ask others what this heavenly point was, and there was no introduction on the panel. But just when he was stunned, three rays of light appeared in front of him one after another. Voices came one after another in my mind. Congratulations on obtaining the Red Brave Level Special Equipment Golden Crown of the Supreme Goblin. Congratulations on obtaining the Red Brave Level Special Equipment Eros the Thinker's Gloves. Congratulations on obtaining the Red Brave Level Blueprint Goblin Machine Violent Demonic Ape King. Hiss. Three pieces of Red Warrior Grade. In the tree hole, Zheng Mu originally thought that such a random treasure chest would at most contain some rare purple items however, Zheng Mu never expected it. It's just three pieces of Red Warrior Grade. The Golden Crown of the Supreme Goblin, Red Brave Level Special Equipment. Only representatives of the Goblin Clan with extremely high intelligence can be called the Supreme Goblin. The wearer can obtain unexpected effects when using and learning manufacturing skills. Eros the Thinker's Gloves, Red Brave Level Special Equipment, one of the secret treasures of the Goblin Clan, named after the God of Manufacturing, Eros of Faith, which can greatly improve the use of manufacturing skills. Success probability, and may trigger unexpected effects. Drawing Goblin Machine Violent Demonic Ape King, records the manufacturing method of each component at the manufacturing material level of the Red Brave Level Mechanical Creation Violent Demonic Ape King. Conditions of Use, LV35 or Above Mechanic. Zheng Mu looked at the three treasures in his hand, and then at the golden treasure chest that gradually turned into nothingness and disappeared because of the end of the lottery. He froze on the spot. There is no doubt that each of the three treasures is directly used by one's profession and has great benefits. This couldn't help but make Xing Mu have some immature guesses about the mysterious Tian Dao point. Chapter, 98 This so-called Tian Dao secret treasure is most likely to be drawn based on the occupation of the recipient, and the Tian Dao point is the number of draws here. Xing Mu opened his own panel, and sure enough, in the line where Tian Dao clicked. The original number 3 also became 0 after 3 extractions. However, I have to say that the thing extracted is not worse than the curse of the world's rejection, of the same level that Zheng Mu is wearing at the moment. The golden crown of the supreme goblin is small in appearance, and is inlaid with gold and blue gemstones. However, there is no specific information explaining which aspect is to be strengthened. It is just vague that it will have unexpected effects. As Zheng Mu put the equipment into his equipment slot, the latter appeared above Zheng Mu's head, but disappeared again after Zheng Mu thought about it. He is actually able to hide his appearance. The effect of the golden crown is unknown for the time being. However, the effect of another thing in the hand, a pair of flawless white silk gloves, is very clear. Zheng Mu took it directly without hesitation. Then I thought about it, took out a T-800 from the storage backpack, and put one hand on the opponent's body. Without hesitation, I realized that the success rate of the use was extremely low, and there was no successful upgrade of the mechanical body none, illustration of renovation factory. As a burst of light bloomed, a golden eye pattern full of divine texture suddenly appeared on the back of the hand of the Eros thinker's gloves. You successfully used the skill and picture transformation, on the mechanical creation T-800, and the mechanical creation T-800 upgraded. You have obtained the mechanical creation T-100, and the corresponding drawings have been recorded. The voice sounded in his mind, the light in front of him dispersed, but the original T-800 in front of Zheng Mu had changed drastically. As if it had turned into a puddle of silver-white liquid metal, the whole body began to twist freely. Then, he gradually transformed into a cold and handsome young man. Name, Bionic Humanoid Combat Robot T-100. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level, Purple Rare Level. Durability, 3W3W. Defense, 100. Skill 1, Liquid Memory Metal, T-100 is constructed of liquid metal, 
can freely change its shape and appearance, and transform into various weapons and equipment, and has extremely strong physical and magic resistance. Skill 2, Killing Access, the T-100 has supercomputing power and can make rational judgments on the target's reaction as early as 2 seconds in combat and calculate the most reasonable attack method. There are only two skills, but compared to the doubling of various attributes and the super effect of liquid metal, Zheng Mu has reason to believe. The T-100 in front of me can directly defeat three or four T-800s. Sure enough, it is exactly what I imagined, an artifact. This glove is definitely a mechanics artifact. Zheng Mu watched excitedly. After he finished using it, the glove in his hand disappeared and turned into a golden mark on the back of his hand. This thing is so cool. NND, I suddenly feel that the death of the elder Chindoshian seems a bit too pitiful. I need to tell that guy when the time comes that the old man's funeral must be prestigious. Zheng Mu shook his head inside, saying this, but there was no trace of shame or regret on his face. The next day. When Zheng Mu led everyone out of the city, entered the goblin forest again, and took out the 200 T-100s that he had worked hard all night. Everyone who saw the properties of these mechanical creations were stunned. What the hell? Looking at the name, it should be an upgraded version of the T-800. The key is blood volume and skills. It's obviously a close-range mad dog that can charge like crazy. Hiss. Isn't this a fucking assassin with a close face? Seeing everyone's shocked eyes, Zheng Mu smiled slightly. After working hard all night, Zheng Mu only succeeded in upgrading half of his T-800s into T-100s, even with the help of the thinker's gloves. If you want to form a large number of them into a group strength, you still need to collect and transform materials according to the drawings, and it is more practical to manufacture them directly. Boss, what should we do next? Kai Shinkuen is now switching from gun to gun. Now that he has reached 422 level, he already has a complete set of 420 purple rare equipment. Seeing that Zheng Mu has come up with so many new things, it must be a big deal. In an instant, everyone was staring at Zheng Mu with burning eyes. Zheng Mu smiled lightly. Pointing to the goblin forest in front of him. The monster levels in the outer reaches of the goblin forest are above level LV20, and the highest level in the core area can reach IV40. Logically speaking, fighting monsters and upgrading here in the goblin forest is completely enough for you, but... Zheng Mu waved his hand casually, and the next moment, in a curtain of light, a stretch of snow-capped mountains covered in white appeared in front of everyone. Zheng Mu's eyes immediately became cold. Think about the injured seniors in the academy, and then think about how these damn country bastards dare to book a place on our property. I can't swallow this breath. Everyone recognized the monster area in the light curtain in front of them at a glance. Officially in the northern part of the Goblin Forest, the Star Moon Snow region controlled by the Bangzi Kingdom, like the Goblin Forest, is a LV-20-440 monster area. And Zheng Mu has already deployed the Patrol Eagle there early at this moment, so what is the next target of action? It's obvious. Zheng Mu looked around. Although his level was only level 25, he was also a newcomer of the same class as everyone present. At this moment, he actually emitted a terrifying aura that only a high-ranking general could have. Pointing to the vastness of the north. Ko can go. I can go too. I will take you to the territory of Bangzi country to book a reservation. Do you dare? As soon as these words came out, the scene was like an explosion. San Luo, an S-level Huang Feng mage, no longer cared about the restraints placed on his profession by the environment there. His face turned red with excitement and he raised his hands in an instant in response. It's done. Whatever the boss said. I, San Luo, will do whatever I want. Ha ha ha, after killing so many sticks, even if I die there, the old man at home will still give me a thumbs up. I will have to give up my seat in the ancestral hall. Wherever the president goes, we will go. Let's do it. Kill all the SB sticks in Xingyue Snow Region. Let Xingyue Snow Region change their surname. Open up new territories. Ha ha ha. Looking at this group of boys, it was as if they had been given a shot of blood, and their IQs instantly returned to strength. 
Leng Binyue stood next to Zheng Mu. Although she was mumbling over and over again that she was crazy, her body took a step forward very honestly and got a little closer to Zheng Mu. Although this guy is a scumbag, he is really manly. Not only Leng Binyue, but also He Shan Yun and Jiang Lan Lan looked at Zheng Mu with obsession, who seemed to have become the center of the world at this moment. Zero request flowers, zero. Seeing the 2,000 members of the Wheel of Truth Guild excited, Zheng Mu nodded with satisfaction. Immediately, he started the base vehicle and led everyone across the Goblin Forest towards the Star Moon Snow Territory in the north. Along the way, everyone was chattering and discussing the matter of killing Bangzi, but Zheng Mu, who was sitting in the base vehicle, had a calm look in his eyes. Although these people trusted him, they still wanted to go together even if they risked death in battle. But he couldn't let these people tell them where they were. At this moment, in the command room of the base vehicle, the patrol eagle that has been deployed has been placed in the sky above the snow, and will not be deliberately noticed at all. And just like this, the situation in this area was quickly investigated by Zheng Mu and others. Ha, huh, there are quite a lot of people, and many of them are still fighting as a team, but they are exactly what I want. When I came out this time, I brought out all the mechanical creations under my command. Among them, Uchiha Muzin and luck-based combat power Mira Jane are also around. Plus his T-100 and the Liquor Legion led by Black Claw. It is definitely not difficult to fight gorillas and eat away all these sticks step by step and silently. At the same time, Southwest Military Attaché University after a few days of adaptation and laughter and laughter among comrades, these elite professional warriors of the Dragon Kingdom who were lucky enough to save their lives from the secret realm of another dimension had no choice but to accept the current situation. In a separate restaurant in the cafeteria of the Weiguan campus, more than a dozen people were sitting here, but every one of them had red eyes. Damn it, I hate it when I think about that guy Guzi carrying more than a dozen mages to besiege him all by himself. My MP is exhausted and I can't even raise his health bar. Those damn gangs and Japanese slaves have absolutely no morals to fight against. They sneak attack. Besiege. All kinds of shameless tactics. All the strong ones in our team are gone. I'm the only one left with the priest. Leave me as a priest who no one can save. A man who was one eight meters tall, when he said this, he could no longer control his humiliation and howled. On the side, Qin Ji and He Guang clenched their fists. The whole team was killed, but only one priest was left who was least likely to survive. They could think of the reason by thinking with their toes. Murder and heart-wrenching. Humiliation. At the same time, it destabilizes the military morale of the professionals in the Dragon Kingdom. The faces of everyone present were filled with unforgettable hatred at this moment. They have applied to the higher authorities more than once, hoping to enter the secret realm of another dimension. Even if they die in battle, they will be reunited with their comrades. However, there are no restrictions on entering the secret realm of another dimension. The quota for each country is fixed. This is a rule set by heaven, and even a person at the level of the protector god cannot reverse it. He Guan looked at these old brothers, each one looking decadent and painful. Suddenly it hit the table with a thud. Gritting teeth. I don't know why, but it was suddenly muttered out of nowhere. When that kid Zheng Mu grows up in the future. We will definitely let those damn beasts experience the ultimate humiliation. Qin Ji was startled, then frowned slightly. In a daze, he was busy settling the retreating soldiers during this period, but he recalled it in shock. During this period of time, it seems that almost no one like Xing Mu has been seen on Campus 10. Chapter, 99 Star Moon Snow Land Under the influence of heaven, the natural environment has also been divided into regions. With the reconnaissance of patrolling eagles in the sky, when Xing Mu and the others entered the snow-covered mountains, they did not attract the attention of the Bangzi country professionals in the area at all. Your level is still too low. Do a good job of investigation before taking any action, and don't be dazzled by the momentary victory. Most of the Bangzi country professionals in this area are around level 30. If you fall into their hands alone, you will definitely be in danger. Large tracks of snowflakes fell. 
At this moment, in a snowy pine forest, the base vehicle had been deployed by Zheng Mu. With a burst of light distortion, it instantly disappeared into this area. The members of the Wheel of Truth Guild, who were all switching from one shot to another, nodded solemnly when they heard Zheng Mu's instructions. I don't know who started first, but Zheng Mu nodded and let them go. Suddenly he spontaneously saluted Zheng Mu with a military salute. Zheng Mu was stunned for a moment, then immediately responded. Seeing these guild members, carrying tea, 100 and liquor respectively, quickly disappearing into the vast snow, he couldn't help but feel a little emotional. Sure enough, the battlefield is the place where professionals can truly grow up quickly. As he said that, Zheng Mu looked at Uchiha Muzin beside him. 700 let's go too. There are still many powerful people here whose levels are beyond their ability to deal with. Deal with them quickly without holding back. Hearing this, Uchiha Muzin smiled slightly, and after bowing and saluting, his body suddenly shot out. Seeing the speed at which the other party disappeared in the blink of an eye, Zheng Mu narrowed his eyes. Is that the warrior's accelerated charge skill just now? It seems like it should be a skill using a copy of the Sharingan. Zheng Mu's mood was slightly agitated, and he was blessed with the extremely growth-producing skill of Sharingan. Uchiha Muzin at least doesn't have to worry about not being able to keep up with him in the future. The wind and snow are flying in the snowy land of stars and moon, and the air is strong. However, inside the base, it was as warm as spring. Spreading out so many mechanical creations, his experience value increase is completely different from doing it himself. As a mechanic, what he has to do is to expand the number and strength of his mechanical creations as much as possible. After seeing the rapid growth of the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild, Zheng Mu was no longer simply satisfied and temporarily reserved the Xinyue Snow Region. He wants to turn this snowy area into a training ground for new military attaches in the southwest. Even if this snowy area is not enough, then keep pushing forward. Even if one day, his military training ground is already facing the Bangzi army. Ha ha ha, I upgraded Appa. If you hadn't brought us here, Appa, to upgrade in those areas of the country, I don't even know when it would have been before I could have been upgraded to IV-207. Me too, thank you Appa, ugh. In a cedar forest, several women from the Bangzi kingdom surrounded a young man and continued to show their attentiveness. In front of them, a dozen snow wolves with 425 had fallen to the ground, leaving behind a colorful ball of light. Really, if you women just express your gratitude like this, I will not be happy. When we get back to the establishment, we have to work hard together. The young man smiled wildly, and his hands had already begun to make illegal moves. However, these women not only lacked any anger, but instead offered sweet kisses one after another. Completely oblivious. In the vast snow, a silver-white winding figure, like a snake, was approaching them quietly from behind them, surrounding the cedars. Suddenly. The cold light reflects. T-100 took action instantly, turning one arm into a sharp spear and stabbing the man in the back. Boom. Ah. Appa. A burst of blue energy shield erupted from the young man who was thrown away, and the latter's expression changed wildly. When his body was moving in midair, he also saw the target of his attack. The pupils suddenly shrank. Shiba. What kind of monster is this? There is no detection information at all, but it has a human-like appearance and its body can twist and change. However, the young man was also a man with two skills. The defensive shield activated by the robe and equipment on his body saved his life and immediately gave him a chance to fight back. However, the female professionals who followed him out to practice leveling all turned pale with fear when they saw him behind them. Appa, be careful. In the howling cold wind, this reminder was already too late. He Shan Yun's beautiful figure appeared without knowing when. The daggers with skill lights blooming in his hands, without hesitation, stabbed the young man in the back with lightning. Crack. You were attacked by the skill fission poison and entered the poison state, which lasted for one minute. You were attacked by the skill black blade and entered the MP escape state, lasting two minutes. You were attacked by the skill necrosis and entered the treatment invalid state, lasting five minutes. 
You were attacked by the skill weakness strike and entered the crit resistance reduction state, which lasted for 5 minutes. You are subject to A series of vicious debuffs that made people numb their scalp caused the young man whose equipment shield to shatter in mid-air to change his expression wildly. Ah, spare my life. The fear-filled cry for mercy has not yet spread in the snow. The next moment, he Shang Yun did not hesitate and pierced the back of his heart with another knife. HP 10400 Most of the young man's health bar was cut off by the fragrant cloud in an instant. The young man who thought he was going to die suddenly burst out with a strong desire to survive. Without hesitation, he seized this opportunity and released his skills to push back He Shang Yun behind him. Shiba. How dare you attack me, a mere V21 idiot. When he saw He Shang Yun's bright level information, his original fear instantly turned into overwhelming anger. He is a dignified 432 professional, and he is also an A level professional. Does this woman have no brains? Or do you think that because you are a mage, you can be succeeded by him? Seeing his HP and MP dropping like crazy, the young man pointed the staff towards He Shang Yun without hesitation. However, at this time, a sharp sound breaking through the air struck instantly. The cedar tree hugged by the two people beside him exploded. The young man's pupils shrank. Just when he saw clearly the archer attacking him in the distance, the next second, a sharp spear with cold light pierced his entire body. It was easy to pick him up. The moment his health bar was cleared, he remembered in shock. There is that unknown monster behind me. Seeing Appa leading himself and others to kill everyone here, he was thrown to the ground like garbage. Those female professionals were so frightened that they screamed in terror and wanted to escape without hesitation. However, the next moment, several figures were already coming from behind them. There is almost no counterattack worth mentioning. Several people received their lunchboxes one after another. The women from Bangzi country are really hard to distinguish, as if they were carved from the same mold. Ha ha ha, collect the loot quickly, this wave of big fat, it seems that these guys are here to fight monsters, there must be a lot of games. He Shan Yun watched everyone cleaning the scene, but he didn't lock his hands tightly. The level is still too low. He had clearly used all the skills that could effectively cause a one-hit kill. But against a LV-32 mage, it can only damage half of the opponent's health. If He Shan Yun's thoughts at this moment were known to others, they would definitely be speechless. You, an assassin who is just over level 20, want to kill someone who is over level 30 with one blow? Do you really think that the grade standards given by heaven are just decorations? Levels limit not only attributes, but also the level of skill trees unlocked by their respective professions. There may be a level difference, if someone has one more powerful skill, you will feel disgusted in the northwest in front of such a person. However, people with ideas like He Shang Yun are now in the hunting ground for professionals from Bangzi country. But there are not a few. At this moment, teams in other places have also begun to make gains. And people around Zheng Mu, such as Leng Bingyue, Kai Xingkuan, Sang Luo, Gu Ming, etc. Each led a team, as if they were competing. In just half a day, the 2000 guild members had an average of one or two lives in their hands. At the same time, in the base, a burst of light also lit up on Zheng Mu's body. You assisted in killing the Snow Shadow Fox 423, and gained 71 experience points. You assisted in killing the Snow Shadow Fox 424, and gained 109 experience points. You assisted in killing the Snow Wolf LV-21, and gained 65 experience points. You have upgraded, your current level is 426. You have new skills to learn. Zheng Mu was stunned for a moment after he had just successfully upgraded a newly assembled T-800 to a 2-7-T-100. Then the corners of his mouth curved slightly. He picked up the ice-cold Feijai happy water on the side and took a sip. The mechanic's happiness has already begun to show up in him. Calculating the time, at this pace, I'm afraid it will take at most two or three days for all the sticks in the Xinyue snow region to be solved. Turning his head slightly, on the light curtain beside him, a black figure looked like a black lightning flashing across the snow. Uchiha Muzin has suddenly arrived at the core area of the Xinyue snow region. 
But here at this moment, a second-rate guild with considerable strength in Bangzi is working together to besiege a level 40 boss. Hold on. This guy can't hold on any longer. The mages and archers will continue their output. As long as we capture this guy, everyone's bonus will be tripled this month. The slightly old voice roared, looking at the crumbling behemoth, the voice was full of excitement. However, no one noticed it at this moment, in the snow not far away. I don't know when Uchiha Musen appeared. He had silently pulled out the Buddha Yuhuan from his waist. You have done a good job. Next, I will take over everything from you. Chapter, 100 Roar The fierce roar shook the snow on the cedar trees and began to fall rustlingly. However, all the fighting professionals present could see that the IV-40 boss, the Star Iron Bear King, had reached the end of his strength. However, he saw that the health bar above the opponent's head was getting lower and lower. When everyone is preparing to increase output. Suddenly. Wow. A terrifying black sword energy that was seven or eight meters high suddenly passed through the crowd. The cold and sinister aura caught everyone off guard and passed directly over the star Iron Bear King. Zheng Mu, who was enjoying the spa service at the outer base of Xinyue's snow region, suddenly heard a voice in his mind. You assisted in killing the boss star Iron Bear King LV-40, and gained 1 BW of experience points. Obtain the white ordinary level item Mysterious Diary. Obtain the purple rare material star Iron Marrow Bone. Get. However, Zheng Mu didn't have much reaction to this. Instead, he looked calmly at the light curtain to the side. In the center of the Xinyue snow domain, there was a yellow light spot representing Uchihamune. But around him, there were at least 200 professionals from Bangzi country with a level of at least 430. Shiba. Who is that person? Shouts of fright and anger came from the mouths of these professionals from the Bangzi kingdom who had been busy for most of the day. However, the first few soldiers to react just turned their heads and saw a terrifying sword light that quickly enlarged. The form of the sword attack is a bit simple and familiar. Zero two is like a low-level skill that most warrior professionals know. Gang Chi Slash However, both the attack strength and the speed of this Gang Chi Slash are beyond the imagination of several people. Pfft. Seeing the warrior who was cut into two pieces instantly as he turned around, the expression of the leader of the old man from Bangzi country changed wildly. Come together. Mage archers focus their fire. The blood volume of those warriors, even if the defense attribute brought by their own equipment is thrown away, is at least 20 0, 0. However, this guy who suddenly appeared in front of him killed several people with a single blow. This move directly frightened all the Bangzi country professionals present. Upon hearing this order, 70 or 80 professionals with long-range attack skills raised their hands and released one after another covering blows at Uchiha Musen not far away. The master's request is to annihilate all of you. Although they are just ants that can be crushed to death, the number is indeed a troublesome issue. Uchiha Musen looked at the overwhelming magical attacks coming towards him. A pair of three Magatama Sharingan eyes suddenly began to rotate rapidly. In a place where no one could see, in his body, the dark breath of ruin was running rapidly in the body. Next moment. Boom. In the midst of the huge magic attack fire, a terrifying nearly 10 meter long black skeleton giant was seen, holding a broadsword and burning with blazing black flames. In a way that almost destroyed everyone's cognition, he became more powerful in the majestic energy tide. As the president of the guild, the old man was so frightened that he couldn't help but take two steps back. His level is 445. He is not a big deal among the second-rate guild leaders in Bangzi country. However, at least in this Star Moon Snow Domain, he is an existence that can completely walk sideways. But even so, I can't see the attributes in front of me. Even the powerful professional who immediately kills immediately has weak legs. Sir, our Luo Ming Guild should not have provoked you, right? The old man asked solemnly. However, Uchiha Musen ignored it. Susanoo's terrifying long sword followed his movements and suddenly hit the team of magicians and archers who had attacked him before. HP 1 2 W. HP 1 8 W. 
HP, 2, 1 W. In an instant, even if they were touched by the terrifying breath of destruction, the health bars of these Bangsy country professionals, whose average level was 430, all dropped sharply. Ah! This guy is a trespassing boss. Run! Quick, go and notify the military affairs office. A random boss has appeared in the Starlight Snow Territory. Don't kill me, don't kill me, my legs, pastor, come and save me. With one strike, at least 30 or 40 people were smashed into pulp on the spot. The rest of the people affected were directly affected by the debuff effect of Breath of Destruction, on their bodies, and they were so frightened that they could not stand up. Now, let alone a gathering battle. Among the crowd, the shield warriors who could cooperate with each other to resist the Star Iron Bear King just now were unable to withstand even one move in front of Uchiha Muzan. And so many magic attacks and skills combined hit the opponent. The guy in front of me didn't dodge, and he didn't seem to be hurt at all. Run! There is no need for orders from the president of this guild. All guild members who didn't want to die here used their escape skills without hesitation. However, Uchiha Muzan is the only one who came here. In the vast heavy snow, ferocious steel monsters suddenly rushed out from each snowdrift. An archer with two rays of light under his feet, like a sharp arrow, quickly ran towards the outside of the monster area. Just after running a few steps, a monster suddenly jumped out from beside him. The ferocious steel fangs and terrifying explosive power left the latter with no time to react. He was thrown to the ground in an instant. The next moment, he bit the opponent's neck with a huge mouth. Crack. Powerful bite force, combined with weak point attack. As an archer in a fragile profession, his health bar was emptied in an instant before he even had time to scream. Seeing hundreds of monsters suddenly blocking their way, the professionals from Bangsi country all turned pale. But at this time, Uchiha Muzan had already rushed over with a fierce murderous intent. The battle can only be described as a one-sided crushing. And the results. When night is about to fall. Lang Bingyue and others withdrew one after another. After fighting for a whole day, everyone's strength improved to some extent. Some people have improved their levels, while others have greatly improved the timing of releasing skills and the accuracy of their attacks. The key is. Each person killed at least two or three Chinese people. And this means that since Zheng Mu and the others quietly entered this monster area, there were at least six to seven thousand professionals from the Bangzi kingdom who were torn apart in just one day. And if we include the number of kills of his mechanical creations. Lord Master, there are too many storage backpacks. The storage warehouse inside the base can no longer store the items in these storage backpacks, so I am afraid that the organization of these items cannot continue. Zheng Mu was startled when he heard the words of the very capable secretary Miss Milaj. But then he looked towards the storage backpacks not far away, which had already piled up two hills of seven or eight meters high. Even he was a little numb. Densely packed, even if one professional has one storage backpack. At the moment, he has six to seven thousand storage backpacks in just the loot alone, not counting the previous harvest in the goblin forest. The number of storage backpacks alone is at least around 1300. If this includes the contents inside. Although Zheng Mu looked down on those low-level materials and equipment, he had earned whatever he snatched from the stick. Ha ha ha, boss, we are going to transport all these storage backpacks back this time and pile them in front of General Qin. General Qin might be frightened out of his wits. Gu Feng was happily grabbing a handful of mutton skewers and chewing them while talking excitedly. It can be seen that the experiences of the past few days have given this somewhat frail boy a more resolute temperament. With Rui Yuruo's murderous aura, he now has the initial appearance of a professional soldier. However, they were enjoying various delicacies made by the chef robot while singing and dancing in this cedar forest. However, there was some considerable turmoil in Bangzi country. Professionals who went to 993 Xinyue snow region lost contact one after another, and no warning message was sent back before the loss of contact. It instantly attracted the attention of everyone in the small Bangzi kingdom. It is a web forum that only professionals can enter on a daily basis. The family members of the professionals who had been buried in this monster area were anxiously asking for news. 
Our Jiming is a sea level for 30 shield warrior. He is very smart. He is also followed by several companions who are all around level 30. It should have been safe, but now three or four hours have passed, and there is no movement. Nothing. My Shuanya is the same. She is a priest. This is her photo. I would like to ask all the adults who have been to Xingyue's snowy land today, have any of them seen it before? I beg you, is there any adult who is willing to help us look for it? I am willing to give you two zero zero stick coins as a thank you gift, please. Are they all missing in the Xingyue's snow region? And with so many people missing all at once, I'm afraid some horrible monsters have appeared. It exceeds the monster level range that should be found in the Xingyong snow region. Look! The official announcement has been made. Captain Chui Zhengyi will lead his team to investigate. Captain Chui Zhengyi and his team are all A-level professionals with 445 or above. Ah! That's great! God bless, Commander Chui Zhengyi will definitely find our child. Pray! The situation in Bangzi country did not attract the slightest attention from Jin Mu. At this moment, he was dealing with a roaring phone call from Qin Ji. Where did you go? You took all the newcomers out. Even if you go to the wild to practice leveling, it has been too long, right? Beside Jing Mu, Kai Shinkuan and others suppressed their laughter, but they all made sly gestures to hiss at Jing Mu. The meaning is very clear, don't tell Qin Ji for the time being. Even Gu Ming and others, who had a slightly cold temperament, had smiles on their lips. Zheng Mu shook his head in his heart. It seemed that everyone, including himself, wanted to see General Qin's shocking appearance. Chapter, 101 After casually perfunctory Qin Ji, Zheng Mu hung up the phone after saying he was safe. On the other hand, I originally planned to take these retired veterans to get to know Zheng Mu, but now I can only give up temporarily. After all, Zheng Mu and the others were not out to enjoy the mountains and rivers, but to fight monsters and level up. This also makes these veterans who have retired with disabilities a lot of relief. Although they heard some rumors about the Weiguan campus in the rear when they were in the secret realm of different time and space, it seems that they have at least sorted things out now. These people all believed it. As long as they are given time to pass on their combat experience and some professional-related common sense on the battlefield to these younger generations, the future Dragon Kingdom professionals will surely be able to win back a victory in the secret realm of different time and space. Those Bangzi and Baga who shamelessly attack them must also pay the price. However, these people could never have imagined that Cheng Mu was not only small-minded, but also brave. At this moment, without their knowledge at all, they led a group of new professionals who had just awakened for a few months to launch a wild killing of the professionals from Bangzi country. Hung Shanha, your team, hurry up. Those grandsons are about to run out of the encirclement. Hurry, hurry, bosses T-100 has passed, this wave is a big fish. We are already here. We must be quick and accurate and take them away in one wave as much as possible. Above the snowy land of stars and moon. More than a hundred members of the Wheel of Truth Guild were divided into more than a dozen teams, and they had once again skillfully launched an encirclement in the vast cedar forest. At this moment, on everyone's shoulders, ice-blue palm-sized beetles were reflecting the luster of metal. The voices of team captains came from among them. This is Zheng Mu's latest work in the past two days. It is a white ordinary level drawing obtained by scanning a low-level monster called Ice Beetle, in the Xinyue Snow region. The white ordinary level mechanical creation shadow insect, can not only communicate normally in some places where communication is interfered with, but can also transmit the environmental images on the other side in real time. There are patrol eagles, in the sky for detection, shadow bugs, on the ground for communication, and T-100s and lickers assist during battles. Among the high level professionals, there is another big demon named Uchiha Musen who focuses on beheading. It had only been three days since Cheng Mu and the others entered the Xingyue snow region, and they had already killed more than 10 zero zero Bangzi country professionals. Moreover, this was despite the fact that the other party had not found any traces at all. Even if the other party sent several elite forces into the Star Moon snow territory. Also with the help of the patrolling eagle overhead, 
they were easily avoided by Zheng Mu and the others. Soon, as the sound of the Hengshan team taking position came from the shadow bug, Zheng Mu, who was far away in the base and was standing in the control room holding a cup of coffee, saw the light curtain. The encirclement began to shrink rapidly. In the encirclement, although the recent hunting has been too frequent. As a result, the size of the professional team in Bangzi country has also expanded a lot, and they all started to stay together for warmth. From the original three or five people who dared to venture into the Xinyue snow region, it has now become a team of at least ten people. At this moment, in the picture, Leng Yan and the others were surrounding and killing a team of 23 national staff members. All high-level professionals who could threaten guild members had already been killed by Uchi Hamugan. At present, among the twenty or so Shao Shiba, Zheng Mu is not worried at all that any of them will be able to escape. In the picture, Leng Bingyue's side has brazenly launched a theft attack. Amidst the exclamations of Smekta and Shiba, when the speed of light pressed these Bangzi country professionals to the ground and rubbed them, the Hong Queen who stood behind Zheng Mu suddenly spoke. Lord Master, Chen Doxian sent a message. According to what he said, the professional management department of Bangzi country has officially issued a notice advising to suspend coming to the Xinyue snow region. It seems that they want to increase the investigation here. Zheng Mu smiled lightly. If the investigation is good, then he can proceed with the next plan with confidence. Notify each team that they no longer need to specifically target those professionals from the Bangzi country. Let them start killing monsters with all their strength and increase their levels. Tell them that before we leave, we want to leave an unforgettable gift to these little Shiba. There was a smile on Zheng Mu's lips, but this smile was full of coldness. At the same time, headquarters of Bangzi Guotelong Guild. In the silence, except for Chen Tongmin's wife and daughter, there were many people crying and howling. Although the other high-level officials of the guild present had serious expressions on their faces, everyone's eyes were focused on Chen Doxian in front of them. Although young Master Doxian is an S-level professional, his level is too low after all. Level 428 alone is not enough to support the entire Tailong Guild, let alone the Tailong Guild, which is now greatly weakened. I propose that Mr. Pu Gutsan will serve as the president next. Although Mr. Pu Gutsan is B-level, he has made a lot of contributions to the guild over the years. He is also 445. We just need to increase our strength and unite. This level can be raised very quickly. In the heavy atmosphere, a senior executive finally spoke first, revealing his fangs against the candidate for the president. Uncle Chui Dushin, who was sitting next to Chen Doxian, suddenly frowned. He was about to say something, but was stopped by Chen Doxian. I will not express my opinion on who will take over the position of president, nor will I take the initiative to express my intention to inherit the guild. Amid everyone's surprised gazes, Chen Doxian looked calmly at Wu Gushen, whose ambition could not be hidden in front of him. According to the rules, even if Vice President Pu Gutsan wants to compete for the position of president, he still needs my father to fulfill his last wish or collect his remains. If Vice President Pu Gutsan can do that, then the position of president belongs to you, Chairman Park. Pu Gutsan looked at Chen Doxian in front of him in confusion, but the latter responded with a humble smile. He immediately thought that Chen Doxian was retreating bravely to save himself. Young Master Doxian, Please rest assured that President Chen has shown me a favor, and I will definitely go all out for his funeral. Seeing these people leaving one after another, Uncle Chui Dushan, who had been being dragged around, suddenly became anxious. Do Xian, you are too impulsive. Tai Long is your father's hard work. How can you just give up like this? You. However, before he could finish speaking, Chen Do Xian interrupted him directly. Uncle. Summon all the guild personnel we can mobilize right now. Of course I have to fight for the position of guild president, but I don't need a guild with opposing voices. Just as the professionals here in Bangzi country were discussing the matter of breaking into the boss in Xinyue snow region, Chen Doxian took the dozens of people he could mobilize overnight. Entered the Xingba domain. Master Doxian, I heard that a very powerful intruder boss has appeared in this area. Even many strong men from first-class guilds have disappeared. We. Hearing everyone's anxious questions, Chen Doxian glanced at them lightly. 
follow me and you can get riches. If you are scared now, just go back. I think President Park will definitely treat you old subordinates promoted by my father well. He won't favor one over the other, and will use the limited guild resources more on his people. This plain sentence instantly silenced everyone present. If Pu Gutsan is really that fair and selfless, then he's really in trouble. Soon, Chindoshian thought for a moment and led everyone to run in one direction. Thick cedars covered the mountains, and soon Chindoshian led everyone to a cave. As soon as they appeared, there was a fierce roar, and two level 27 snow wolves rushed out. Click. Crack. Accompanied by the use of two skills, one is to imprison and the other is to attack. Chindoshian made a quick move and easily defeated these two monsters, and then understood them easily. Although there is not much difference in levels, the power of S-level professions is beyond the reach of these guild members present. Master Doshin. Treasure Box. There is a treasure box inside. With an excited exclamation coming from the cave, the two assassins who had just entered immediately ran out. Seeing the treasure box, everyone couldn't help but look at Chindoshian. I have heard that light group loot will be dropped when fighting monsters, such as treasure chests, but even Chui Dusheng has never heard of it. When Chindoshian saw this treasure box, joy flashed in his eyes. Sure enough, the adult had already made arrangements. Huh, what happened in the Xingyue snow region recently is very strange. It is indeed very dangerous, but... Chindoshian pointed to his head with a mysterious look. But I am able to get many opportunities safely from danger. It seemed that he had said something, but he didn't seem to reveal anything. However, the eyes of the Tai Long Guild members present Wangs, were already burning. As the treasure chest opened, a burst of blue light appeared, and a burst of purple light appeared that made everyone breathe. Everyone went crazy. Purple equipment. It's actually purple equipment. Oh my god, it's level 430 purple equipment. Yu 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 Young Master Doshian is indeed an S-level profession, he can actually find such a treasure chest. Master, all of us support you. You can compete for the president. No, Master Doshian should inherit the guild. Chen Doshian smiled calmly, but when he later led everyone to find more than a dozen treasure chests, everyone's eyes changed when they looked at him. Even Chui Dusheng, who had some ideas of his own before, couldn't help but make a decision when he touched the extra purple rare level armor at this moment. When everyone returned home with a full load, the news reached the ears of other guild members. A large crowd of fans immediately appeared around Chen Doshian. At the same time, Zheng Mu, who received the news from Chindoshian, also had a strange smile on his face. If you want to catch more fish, how can you not give up some bait for making nests? When the news from the Tai Long Guild gradually spreads, the Xingyue Snow Region, which has just been silent for a long time, will inevitably welcome a large number of Bangzi country professionals. Chapter 102 Appa, have you heard? Master Doshian and the others seem to have found a treasure in the Xingyue Snow region. I saw that many of the people following Master Doshian have new equipment. Yes, yes, I saw it too. Even that bastard Jolie got a purple rare level weapon. Although the level is not high, it is a purple rare level weapon after all. What? Can Jolie, that sea level professional bastard, have purple rare equipment? Axie. Tai Long Guild Headquarters. In order to take the position of president as soon as possible, Vice President Pu Gutsan has been busy dealing with the affairs of the previous president these days. But when his subordinates came to report, the situation had reached a point where he was shocked. Guild President. Something bad has happened. Two-thirds of the people in the guild have now taken refuge in that boy Chindoshian. The remaining people have also begun to hesitate obviously. What? When he learned about what happened recently from his subordinates, Wagushin could hardly believe his ears. That second-generation ancestor who has nothing to offer except his S-level profession, actually has such ability. When I heard that this boy Chindoshian, in three or four days of silence, he led people to inexplicably harvest thirty or forty purple rare-level equipment from the Xingyue Snow Domain, as well as thousands of blue elite-level equipment. When equipped, Pu Gutsan suddenly couldn't sit still. He really couldn't sit still. 
If this situation continued, everyone under him would definitely switch to Chindoshian, let alone the position of president. Whether he can keep his position as vice president is a matter of two opinions. Immediately, when he received the news that Chindoshian was leading people into the Xinyue snowy territory again, he did not hesitate to lead people to follow quietly. When they saw Chindoshian and the others from a distance, they really found treasure boxes one by one in the snowy field and took out various equipment from them. Everyone's breathing 510 became heavier. President. How about we? Seeing that the capable men under his command had red eyes, Pu Gutsan's face tightened and he hurriedly stopped them. No. At this time, the hearts of the people are with that kid. If we take action at this time, we will be disadvantaged in terms of numbers. Then are you just going to watch that bastard Chindoshian become arrogant step by step? Pu Gutsan's eyes were gloomy, looking at Chindoshian who was surrounded by stars, as if he had become the current president of Tai Long Guild. After thinking for a long time, the sinister look in his eyes flashed away. Ha, huh, that kid thinks he has some information that others don't know, and he can use it to win over people's hearts what if he can't stand these treasures. Just when Chen Doshian brought everyone back with a full load again. This time, the number of people paying attention to him was obviously more than a hundred times more than before. Chen Doshian's expression was dull, and the coldness in his eyes did not diminish at all. Sure enough, People from other guilds came to the door soon, openly and covertly wanting to inquire about something from him. The desire to get a piece of the pie is almost written directly on his face. After Chui Dushin repeatedly denounced them, these people left temporarily, but everyone understood that these people would never give up. After a night of silence, when Chen Doshian and the others set off from the guild again to the Star Moon Snow region, this time the people following them had no intention of hiding anything. Some act individually, while others act in groups. It was densely packed with thousands of people at least. Master Doshin. Shaking his head slightly to stop the worries of several people, Chen Doshin glanced at the sky without trace. Among the thousands of people right now, he was the only one who was very sober. Is there any powerful boss that invades somewhere? Where are the treasures that appear? Everything is controlled behind the scenes by Zheng Mu and other Dragon Kingdom professionals who no one expected. The guild members around him who were happily equipped with new gadgets didn't know. The equipment they were wearing was stained with the blood of their previous owner not long ago, so wearing it on them at this time was only temporary. As for the figures following behind. Chen Doshian knew very well that according to the adult's appetite, the number of these people was far from enough. Next, more fresh bait needs to be spread out to attract more professionals into this snowy area that has secretly become a hunting ground for professionals from Bangzi country. Roar! With an unwilling cry, a monster that looked like a saber-toothed tiger fell to the ground with a roar, and balls of light exploded on the spot. Then the people who were following not far away were shocked to see a member of Tai Long Guild take out a treasure box from the hole under a tree next to the monster. As the treasure chest opens, that purple light that made everyone's breath quicken appeared in everyone's eyes. Ah there is actually a treasure chest. There is actually purple rare equipment. It's not just purple rare level equipment. Look, there's something else in the treasure box. That's a purple rare level potion. No, we must not let that boy from Tai Long Guild take all the advantages. Quick, look around. Maybe there are some around. He looked at the professionals who instantly swarmed into the cedar forest and looked around frantically. Chen Doshian's eyes were calm, but the guild members around him suddenly became nervous. Because they discovered that these guys were not just looking for treasure chests. They surrounded them intentionally or unintentionally. Master Doshian, what should we do? It seems that if these guys don't find the treasure chest, they will start taking action. Master Doshian, think of a way. Master Doshin. Listening to the chaotic sounds around, and Park Gutsan Akaj, in the crowd who looked gloating about his misfortune. Chen Doshin raised his head slightly without any trace. Everything here is progressing steadily in the direction set by that adult. And with an excited cry of ecstasy coming from one direction in the cedar forest, the members of the guilds who were originally surrounding Chen Doshin instantly rushed towards that direction like crazy. Treasure Chest I found a treasure chest here. 
Ahahaha. That's great. When everyone saw the treasure box held by one of the professional team, the fanatical look on their faces could no longer be concealed. Sure enough. Although there have been a lot of dangers in the Shinyue Snow Territory recently, and there are also some random boss activities, the way of heaven has brought opportunities in the midst of such dangers. Quick, let's go somewhere else. That bastard Chindoshian is obviously just trying his luck. There must be other places in the snowy area with many treasure chests. Let's go quickly and notify other people in the guild quickly. Crazy. Throughout the Shinyue Snow Territory, there are professionals from the Bangzi Kingdom looking for treasure boxes everywhere. Among them, even some Tailong Guild members who were originally following Chindoshian broke away from the team and began to search for treasure chests in these areas alone. It's just the end of the day. Almost half of the professionals found the existence of the treasure chest from the Star Moon Snow region. The number of people exploring the Star Moon Snow region in a single day has soared to a terrifying more than 15,000 people. And this number has skyrocketed crazily as more and more people find the treasure chests and unlock purple rare items. Outside the Shinyue snow region. In the base. Boss, should we take action? These guys are all crazy. If this continues, we may not have enough bait. Boss, we can't be greedy anymore. If we continue, I'm afraid our trophies will be all cheap to these bastards. President, let's take action. Seeing that even girls like Leng Binyue looked like they were in love, Zheng Mu smiled slightly. Indeed, it's time to harvest another wave after all, if there is no random boss for such a long time, it will arouse some suspicion. When it comes to challenging the boss, it's not just Zheng Mu. Everyone present had a strange smile on their lips. With the cooperation of many parties, each of their actions was so seamless. In addition, the passing monsters destroyed the corpses of those sticks, which was simply a case of death without evidence. They have been here for almost a week. The number of professionals from Bangzi country who died in their hands has exceeded 10 0, 0 quietly. However, except for Chen Doxian, the puppet controlled by Zheng Mu, no one from the Bangzi kingdom thought that it was they, the Dragon Kingdom professionals who they looked down upon, who were controlling everything behind the scenes. After a few days of upgrading and fighting monsters, the average level of members of the Wheel of Truth Guild has reached 423. Although it is still not as good as those professionals from Bangzi country who have been awakened for many years, it is completely enough to harvest in secret. Looking at the people who couldn't wait to organize people and designate plans, Zheng Mu had no intention of interfering, he had already provided enough help. Too much equipment, reconnaissance, and even protection during combat have been given. The rest requires Leng Bingyue and the others to work hard and grow up. In the base vehicle, silence suddenly returned. But Zheng Mu walked towards his room. Two T-100s manufactured using T-800 upgrades are respectfully waiting here. Zheng Mu looked at the two people who were no different from normal humans under disguise, and gently placed a hand on one of them. The next moment, the skill Mechanical Body Cell Transformation was launched. Mechanical Body Cell Transformation Successful Absorption Target Bionic Humanoid Combat Robot, 100. Congratulations on getting. Chapter, 103. The Mechanical Body Cell Transformation was successful and the target Bionic Humanoid Combat Robot T-100 was absorbed. Congratulations on getting, Strength Attribute 80, Agility Attribute 80. As the T-100 in front of him was enveloped in skills, it gradually collapsed. In the end, just like the original T-800, it was absorbed and fused by Zheng Mu, becoming a part of him. The feeling of fullness brought about by the body's short-term improvement made Zheng Mu's body swell slightly, as if he had become stronger in an instant. Looking in the mirror, he seemed to have become more like himself. Zheng Mu's eyes were full of excitement. Mechanical Cell Transformation this skill is invincible, although not all mechanical creations can be absorbed by it, and each mechanical creation can only use this skill once. But this sudden surge in attributes is comparable to other equipment with powerful attributes. The most important thing is that these attributes are the attributes of Zheng Mu itself, even if he is running naked on the street, he has such attributes. After slightly adapting to the changes in his body, 
Jin Mu reached out to another T-100. The life source cells were successfully transformed and the target bionic humanoid combat robot T-100 was absorbed. Congratulations on getting, physical attribute 100, mental attribute 20. Following another surge in attribute points, Zheng Mu couldn't wait to open his brand new attribute panel. Name, Zheng Mu. Occupation, A-level mechanic. Level, 426-0170-W. HP, 18W18W. MP, 54005400. Computing power, 500560. Power, 186. Agility, 185. Mental power, 96. Physique, 207. Skills, Combat Analysis IV-3, Weapon Proficiency Max, Gold Conversion Hands LV-1, Firepower Reset LV-3, Ordnance Transformation LV-3, Computing Strength Enhancement LV-3, Mechanical Cells LV-3, Nanomagnetic Field Scanning LV-3, Module Seal Engraving IV-2, Ghost Step IV-3, Biological Scanning LV-3, Nanomechanical Wave IV-3, Mechanical Body Cell Transformation LV-3, Life Source Cell Transformation LV-3, Intelligent Component Upgrade LV-1, Mechanical Inner Cabin LV-1, Shadow Machinery LV-1, Conservation Doubled. No Picture Transformation Max. Mechanical Creations, Magical Special Robot Uchiha Musen, Magical Battle Robot Mira Jane, Transformers Base, Transformers Optimus Prime, Liquor 120, Bionic Humanoid Battle Robot T-838, T-10285, 3D Area Maid Servant 4, Patrol Eagle 800, Bolt Beetle 100, Shadow Worm 300. With the sudden increase in various attributes, in addition to the most direct change in the body, the HP on the panel increased by a cup, to nearly 20 0, 0 in an instant. Hiss, 18 0, 0 HP. You can tell me that my profession has no requirements for HP, but with this amount, Ordinary level 426 human shield warriors may not be my opponent. Zheng Mu thought happily, and suddenly thought of something. By the way, I really think there are new skills I haven't learned yet. As the skill tree panel was opened by Zheng Mu, the first thing that caught his eye were two flashing skill icons. Load activation V1, it can make the mechanical creations under your command shorten the skill cooling time of the mechanical creations by continuously reducing their durability. Cooling time, none. Computing power occupied, 30 computing enhancement reduced by 50%. Ordnance deduction IV-1, existing materials can be used, based on professional weapons, to create mechanical components similar to weapons used by mechanical creations. Cooling time, 12 hours. Computing power occupied, 30 computing enhancement reduced by 50%. Damn, my computing power is completely exhausted now. Zheng Mu looked at the two skills and couldn't think of a reason not to learn them. However, looking at the 560,560 computing power limit, I felt like crying without tears. Even with the help of the system, he can create so many mechanical creations that do not require computing power. However, the computing power consumed by a mechanic in learning skills is enough for him to drink a pot. Fortunately, these skills really cannot be ignored. Just as Jing Mu was studying the skill information, the Red Queen appeared in Jing Mu's room amid the sound of hurried footsteps. Lord Master, I found out the coordinates recorded in the mysterious diary you provided before. Following the Red Queen's thought, the next moment a huge light curtain appeared in front of Jing Mu. It was the map of the Xinyue snow region, and as the map continued to zoom in on a place, a snow mountain came into view. According to what was recorded in the mysterious diary, if it is true, the purple rare star moon metal veins are located in this snow-capped mountain. Zheng Mu pondered slightly. To be honest, this was the first time he encountered a collectible resource point worthy of his attention in the wild. It is really purple rare star moon iron, especially a whole vein of it, which cannot be ignored. Not only does it mean that a large number of high-level blacksmiths can be cultivated, but it also allows a country to possess a lot more purple rare grade materials. In the secret realm of different time and space, countries are fighting to the death, all kinds of mechanisms are exhausted, and the bottom line is broken. In the end, it's not about resources. 
whether it is experience dropped by monsters or equipment, these are resources needed for professional growth. However, the value of this rare purple metal vein like the one Jing Mu discovered at this moment is not low at all. The only thing that's a bit difficult to do right now is. The Star Moon Snow Territory is the boundary of Bangzi Kingdom. He is now secretly doing small things here, harvesting some Zyoxaba is okay, but he wants to mine a purple rare mineral vein here for a long time. That was definitely another big confrontation. TSK, 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 if those little Shiba know that I have killed tens of thousands of their professionals, and want to snatch one of their purple rare grade mineral veins they will go crazy, right? Just when Jing Mu was thinking about how to control this mineral vein. At the same time. At this moment, the hunt for these professionals in Bangzi country was once again quietly launched. As more and more people join the queue to find treasure chests, they want to find the treasure chests as much as possible and get the purple rare equipment they dream of. Many people did not care about any possible infiltration bosses that still existed, and dispersed one after another to search for them in more remote places in the Xingyue snow region. And the result is. Boom. Ah. People from the Dragon Kingdom. You are from the Dragon Kingdom. Why are the people from the Dragon Kingdom here, Shiba? Rush, rush over and kill them. In a cedar forest, several Bangzi country professionals with almost level 30 were seriously looking for the shadow of the treasure chest. A sudden attack suddenly fell on their heads. Without any precautions, the mages and priests in the team received their lunch boxes on the spot. Zero please give me flowers. The rest of the people were also pressed to the ground and rubbed by a group of Wheel of Truth members led by Kai Shinkuen amid fierce gunfire. Finally, the T-100's arms turned into two sharp blades, giving them a heart-wrenching move. They all hated the Northwest. Cracking. A bird song came from overhead. Just when a few people had just dealt with these professionals from Bangzi country, several patrol eagles fell down one after another. Grab a few people's storage backpacks and the intact treasure box, and fly into the sky. The storage backpack will be returned to base. As for the treasure chest, it will be placed elsewhere immediately, waiting for the next person. Another day has come to an end. When Chin Doshian brought his people back to the guild headquarters. I heard about the number of missing professionals announced by the Department of Professional Management today. On the first day of a large-scale professional hunt for treasure in the snow. The number of missing professionals has once again surged to more than 500 people. When hearing this number, the union members around Chin Doshian had no reaction, but his hands were shaking uncontrollably. What's wrong with you, Appa? A cute voice came from beside her, and Chin Doshian's sister looked curiously at her brother who looked a little ugly. Seeing everyone looking over at the dining table, Chen Doshian shook his head hurriedly. It's nothing, I'm just a little tired. Despite what he said, Chen Doshian's eyes were wandering around the people at home while eating. After their mother and sister heard the number of missing professionals, except for being slightly surprised, they had no other emotions. Even his uncle Chui Xingdu, now one of the vice presidents of Tailong Guild, only shook his head slightly. There was no doubt that there was anything wrong with it. However, it was precisely because of this that when Chin Doshian looked at the missing figure of 5,000 reported in the news, he felt as if he had fallen into an ice cave. He knew very well that these people were already dead. He died in the hands of a group of new professionals from the Dragon Kingdom, and this was just the beginning. Nowadays, the number of professionals from the Bangzi Kingdom entering the Xingyue Snow Region is increasing every day. And among this huge number, a certain number of people lost contact and no one cared. After all, the official had already made speculation before that there might be a possibility of infiltrating the boss. Once you are unlucky enough to meet that kind of guy. The loss of contact doesn't seem surprising. However, Chen Doshian knew clearly that the loss of contact of 5,000 people a day was only temporary. As this huge snowball grows bigger and bigger. Sooner or later, he will be easily crushed by the Dragon Kingdom man who controlled him. By then, it will no longer be an acceptable number. The entire Bangzi kingdom will be shaken by this. If Sheng Mu were here, he would definitely tell him that this was called a Ponzi scheme in his previous life. 
However, a Ponzi scheme is a financial trap. Use the huge yield to defraud a large amount of funds, and pay high interest to make the snowball grow. Then he rolled the whole snowball and ran away. Zheng Mu's move was to use a large amount of equipment obtained from Bangzi country professionals and use treasure boxes as bait to attract more and more Bangzi country professionals to join the treasure hunt. When the number of people reached his expectation, that is, the curtain call ceremony prepared by Zheng Mu for them started with a knife. Chapter 104 Time flies and a week has passed. With the efforts and cooperation of Ling Binyue and other teams, these members of the Wheel of Truth Guild went completely crazy. The evil spirit that each of them possesses after experiencing fierce fighting over and over again has already reached a certain level. The laughter during the action decreased, and everyone seemed to have become a silent hunter in the jungle. Hiding in the dark, watching each prey fall into their trap. On the first day of the operation, the Bureau of Professionals of Bangzi State announced the list of reported missing persons. There are 5,339 people, basically all level 20 professionals, including some new professionals this year. On the second day of the operation, the number of missing persons on the list increased again, reaching 5,872. Nearly 600 professionals lost contact in one day, which finally made Bangzi country officials a little bit unable to sit still. They increased the dispatch of investigation teams, hoping to investigate the situation of the intruder into the boss as soon as possible. At the same time, he hurriedly issued an appeal, hoping that professionals in his country would try not to go to the Star Moon Snow region. However, just when the Professional Reserve Management Department thought that the situation would be better on the third day. In the early morning of that day, Chen Doxian of Tai Long Guild and his guild member 360 directly collected more than 30 purple rare equipment of different levels. When the news spread, the number of professionals from the Bangzi Kingdom who entered the monster area of the Star Moon Snow Territory that day directly exceeded the 40-00 mark. As a result, the number of missing people was released again on the third day, and undoubtedly reached a new height again. 6,419 people High in the sky with heavy snow flying in the sky, Zheng Mu had already released all the patrol eagles under his command. A total of 8,000. Nowadays, it seems that it is a bit stretched because of the transportation of loot, the dispatch of personnel investigation and other issues. Therefore, under Lang Binyue's control. On the fourth day, the number of missing professionals in the Xinyue snow region was 5,287. The fifth day, Area 598. On the sixth day, 4,784 people. On the seventh day, 6,649 people. Such horrific casualties only persuaded some professionals to stop. Purple Rare Level Weapons. From today on, I also have Purple Rare Level Weapons. In the city of Bangzi Kingdom closest to the monster area of Xinyue Snow Domain, as the teleportation array was operating, figures ran out of the teleportation array excitedly. A young professional who was obviously not very old was wearing a piece of blue elite level armor. However, in his hand, he held an exaggerated and handsome long sword high, emitting bursts of light. As soon as he appeared, he immediately became the focus of the scene. Sir, we are members of the Dakong Guild. We don't know whether the weapon in your hand can be sold or not. Our Dukong Guild is willing to invest 200 billion in national currency to purchase it. 200 billion. Are you thinking of taking the bullshit? Get out of here. Little brother, our Sidley Association is investing 250 billion. We have 300 billion. Asaba, who else dares to compare with me? Ah. Looking at the young man who was instantly surrounded by a large group of people, everyone's faces were full of envy and passion. However, this is only the beginning. Later, when more and more people with purple rare level weapons in their hands came out of the teleportation array, everyone had already forgotten the number of missing professionals announced by the professional management department today. Axiba. Look at that bastard's proud look, and those bitches, is it just a purple rare weapon? We are going to the Star Moon Snow region tomorrow, and we will definitely be able to find the treasure chest tomorrow. This is an opportunity for us people to make a comeback. 
As long as we have a purple rare level equipment, our upgrade speed will definitely be greatly accelerated, and we may even be able to kill the boss directly. Yeah, I'll go there again tomorrow and I can't find purple rare equipment. I'd rather die in the Star Moon Snow region than be stepped on by those bastards. Around the teleportation array, people who had not gained anything this time were also talking in low voices. Each one looked at the acquaintances surrounded with envy and jealousy. However, how many of these people surrounded in the middle can withstand the temptation of a second purple rare level equipment? Each one of them seemed to be a gambler, having already lost their judgment on the recent strange situation in the Xingyue Snow Land. Tai Long Guild, in the President's office. Chen Doxian is sitting here. Although the President of Tai Long Guild is still vacant in the Union Management Department, he is now supported by more than 80% of the entire guild. Sit in this position. As night fell, there was no quietness outside the city. From the window of the office, you can just see the operating teleportation array from a distance. Even in the dark, there are still an endless stream of Bangzi country professionals coming and going. If it were in the past, if Chen Doxian was elected as the guild president by the guild members, he would definitely be happy to hold a super silver party. However, at this moment, he looked at the professionals who entered the teleportation array and went out into the wilderness. But it feels like those people have stepped into the gate of hell. In one week, more than 40 workers were killed are you a human or a ghost? At this moment, his mind was filled with Cheng Mu's calm and easy-to-get-together face. In his mind, this face was quickly equated with the devil. Just when Chen Doxian was enduring the torment of his conscience, his cell phone suddenly rang. When he saw the content of the unfamiliar text message sent from above, his pupils shrank. As if he saw something terrifying, he screamed and smashed the phone directly. No, it can't be. There are more than 40 zero zero people. Counting the previous ones, nearly five people have died in their hands. Aren't they satisfied yet? Chen Doxian knelt on the ground, his heart twitching violently. However, the very next moment the idea of not exposing what Cheng Mu and the others had done to the public came up in his mind. Ah! Suddenly, the energy of ruin that flowed through his body was suddenly mobilized. In addition to being able to howl hysterically, Chen Doxian had even lost control of his body. Because of the intense pain, the brain seemed to be about to leave the body. But at this time, under the gaze of Chen Doxian's eyes that almost stared out, the black aura of ruin on his body slowly condensed. The next moment, it condensed into a figure that made him break out in cold sweat. I feel some bad thoughts from you. A plain sentence, coupled with the fact that the darkness seemed to be glowing with light, like the Sharingan that a demon was watching. It was like a thunder exploded in Chen Doxian's mind. A stream of heat, accompanied by a fishy smell, finally flowed out from between the legs. There was no other emotion on Uchiha Musen's face except coldness. Lord Master asked me to ask you a question. Tell me, if your uncle, or your Vice President Pu Gutsan, could bring so many benefits to the members of the guild like you, do you think they would be more obedient than you? Working harder than you? Chen Doxian was trembling and couldn't say a word, he could only nod his head tremblingly. The pain that is being released from every cell in the body is coupled with the fear of Zheng Mu and Uchiha Musen that goes deep into his soul. He didn't dare to say a word no at all. Seeing that this guy was finally honest, Uchiha Musen's body began to slowly turn into black and a breath of ruin floated away. The deadly silent office returned to calm with a dull warning sound. The things assigned by the master must be completed seriously. Hu ho ho. The pain in his body disappeared, and Chen Doxian collapsed directly to the ground. Sweat mixed with the fishy smell was smeared on the floor. However, he didn't want to lift a finger. The next day, a piece of news that detonated the Tai Long Guild was accidentally leaked from Chen Doxian's side. A place called the Valley of the End appears in the Star Moon Snow region. Recently, a treasure chest containing Red Warrior level equipment will appear there. This news is so exciting. Especially the source came from the Tai Long Guild, which had gained the most recently. Some people instinctively believe it. Immediately, everyone began to search for the Valley of the End mentioned by Chindoshian in the Xingyue Snow region. 
At the same time, outside a mountain range in the Xinyue snow region, three, seven Zheng Mu looked at a member of the Wheel of Truth Guild who had collapsed on the ground from exhaustion, an A-level professional whose profession was a mage-type rock magician. One of the opponent's skills is to control rocks. After consuming hundreds of bottles of high-level MP recovery potions, the huge valley with two huge figures facing each other appeared in front of him. Yes, Mr. President, do you have any other requests? Please let me slow down and I will handle it for you immediately. Although the tired debuff has appeared on the panel, this member still asked without complaint. Zheng Mu waved his hand and asked someone to help him go down to rest. I really don't understand you. You can bring them together for any reason, but you still want to make such a big fuss. Leng Bingyue nestled in Zheng Mu's arms and murmured quietly. Zheng Mu smiled faintly, put one hand on the other's nose, shook his head and sighed in a funny way. This time we have no more customers than before. Even if there are many monsters around, we can't finish processing the corpses. We should at least have the most basic services and environmental awareness, shouldn't we? For more than 40 people, it is enough to use such a tomb. Chapter, 105 Red Brave Level Equipment when this news came out, let alone Hancheng, which was close to the Xinyue snow region. Even professionals from cities farther away rushed over one after another. Suddenly, a large number of professionals from other parts of Bangzi Kingdom poured into the already small Hancheng, and the issues these people discussed with each other were, without exception, all about Red Warrior level equipment. This is a Blue Star version of the Ponzi scheme planned by Zheng Mu, which is beyond the reach of ordinary people. Why until now, no one has doubts about the weirdness. There is no doubt that it is the various trophies that Jing Mu scattered. As long as those who go to the Star Moon Snow region, most of them will basically gain something. Or even if you don't find purple rare equipment, blue elite equipment is still a good harvest. In addition, all those who encountered the random boss disappeared directly. There is no visual stimulation of corpses and seriously injured people, and just relying on the numbers updated every day by the professional management department cannot have an impact on these people who have been dazzled by getting rich. Is there really red hero level equipment? Oh my god, can that kind of thing appear in a place like the Star Moon Snow region? I don't believe it either, but my cousin really found an IV-18 purple rare equipment in the Xinyue Snow region. Even if it is not suitable for my own use, if it is sold to new professionals from big families, it will be a windfall. Ah. Humph, LV-18 purple rare level. What does that mean? Let me tell you that Chindoshian, the second-rate guild 02 Tailong guild, who is about to succeed as the president, is also the first person to know about the treasure box. Just yesterday, he got a level 430 purple rare sword, which is the kind of equipment with good bonus attributes. Hiss. Asaba, why didn't I come here earlier? Otherwise, I might have a purple rare level weapon now. In Han City, there is a lot of buzz about the recent treasure chest in the Xinyue Snow Land. However, at this moment, as the first person to experience this incident, Chen Doxian looked at the imposing man in front of him with an ugly expression. He never expected that the red warrior level equipment would even provoke this big shot. Hey! What I said should be very clear, right? With so many people staring at you, don't think about that piece of equipment. Everyone will definitely be staring at you by then. You are only a second-rate guild, and you have still experienced this. A second-rate guild that suffered huge losses in personnel. There's no way to keep the Red Warrior level equipment. The young man had an arrogant face, with an aloofness that seemed to match his face. Tell me everything you know. Aren't you planning to annex Tongyun Guild and Shundao Guild recently? Our immortal guild will help you handle this matter. Chen Doxian's face was ugly, and his hands under the table were clenched tightly. Not that there was any anger. He was worried, but he knew very well that the so-called Red Warrior level equipment was just the last piece of honey to deceive these guys. When they find out it's all a scam. They will be shocked to find that they have fallen into a trap and cannot escape. Forget about other guilds being wiped out because of this incident, if something happens to the second generation ancestor of a mortal guild, one of the top guilds in Bangzi country, there. He absolutely cannot protect himself. Master Jean Long, 
it's not that I don't share this information. In fact, I don't dare to confirm this information at all. It has no verification power at all. There is now a terrifying intruder boss in Xinyue snow region causing chaos. It has been half a month. Official no information was found from the investigation. However, Quan Jinlong did not listen to his explanation at all, and directly stretched out his hand, his eyes full of impatience and fierceness. In the end, Chen Doxian reluctantly handed the other party a piece of paper with the coordinates written on it. Master Jinlong, I know that the Red Warrior level equipment is not something I can get my hands on, but for your safety, please don't go there in person. After all, the unknown boss has never appeared. The treasure chest incidents that have happened in the past all reveal a strangeness. Quan Jinlong, who had just stood up, frowned and was about to say something when an old man dressed as a butler beside him suddenly spoke. Master, what Master Doshian said is not wrong. I can just help you with this matter. The location of the Valley of the End was finally found out quickly after a large number of Bangzi country professionals searched for it. It looked like a huge statue that had never been seen before, at least 10 meters high. Two stone statues whose specific faces cannot be seen clearly, but which somehow give people a huge intimidation, stand opposite each other. In the middle of the stone statue is a huge gap. When the old man, Quan Jinlong's bodyguard, rushed over according to the coordinates, at least 2,000 people were already gathered here. Moreover, this number is still rising crazily. The old man frowned slightly. After observing the two stone statues in front of me for a while, I felt an indescribable strange feeling in my heart. It seemed like something was wrong, but I couldn't figure it out after thinking about it for a long time. As time goes by, when night gradually falls, no less than 30 00 Bangsi country professionals have gathered here in the valley of the end. The chattering and chaotic scene made the old man frown even deeper. However, he had already explored the entire valley before, and the imaginary treasure chest was not found. But thinking about what Chen Doshian said, the time is uncertain. He could only continue to wait silently. However, out of caution, he silently added several layers of shielding skills to himself. Boss, are there too many people? The number of people being scanned is almost over 40 zero, zero. A dozen kilometers away from the valley of the end, on a hilltop, nothing could be seen that should not exist. The snow is still snow, and the flying snow is still flying. However, at this moment, behind the hidden effect of a layer of light and shadow, is a huge steel base. Kai Shinkuan finally lost his temper and asked worriedly. However, Zheng Mu was quite calm about this. It's almost over. Isn't it not over yet? I've secretly sealed off the surrounding area. Even if it's over, there are a few lucky ones who can't escape. Relax. However, as soon as he finished speaking, the Red Queen's voice immediately sounded. Scan the number of people to confirm, there are 40 zero, zero people within the strike range. Zheng Mu immediately put down the coffee cup in his hand, and Fu gave the order without hesitation. Fire. The torrent of firepower system, 10 rounds of volleys, let me out without stopping. Necrotic laser cannon ready. The next moment, on the top of the base, turrets rose up amidst the clicking sounds of machinery, as the shells were quickly loaded. Boo-hoo! The sharp whistling sound suddenly penetrated the white gauze in the sky, against the huge wind and snow, under the gaze of all the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild from the outside world. Soar into the sky. The first round of firepower had just been released, and at the next moment, another burst of sharp whistling sounds flew out. The Valley of the End. At night, the Star Moon snowfield is cold and windy, and from time to time, a monster may appear around you, leaving the professionals present with no time to rest. However, with the bait of Red Brave level equipment and so many competitors around him, they didn't dare to rest either. Well? Appa, did you hear anything? A group of lovers who were chatting with each other suddenly seemed to hear something. When the man heard this, he also raised his head in confusion. He was not the only one to do this. Standing under a stone statue, the old man closed his eyes to relax and suddenly opened his eyes. 
Just when he thought the Red Hero level equipment was about to appear, he looked up and saw hundreds of black shadows roaring towards him, but his pupils suddenly shrank. Shiba. With almost no hesitation, the old man instantly displayed his most powerful defensive skills. And as a golden light exploded on the old man's body, the shadow of a big clock instantly enveloped him. Next moment. Boom, 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 boom. Hundreds of heavy shells fell among the dense crowd of professionals, and corpses were everywhere in an instant. However, before the crowd of people who were screaming in terror could come to their senses, another roar came from above their heads. The old man 863, who was gritting his teeth and outputting MP, trying his best to maintain the durability of the golden bell above his head, heard this voice, and the expression on his old face changed drastically. Such a horrific attack is still possible. He didn't even have time to think about the source of the attack, nor did he have time to think about all the weird things happening in Xingyue's snow region recently, and what the weirdness was. Boom boom boom. According to Zheng Mu's order, under the control of the Red Queen, and the precise positioning of the patrol eagle, each attack landed accurately at the center of the crowd. When Zheng Mu used fire reset, in the second round, the Valley of the End directly withstood thousands of intensive bombardments. However, looking at the billowing black smoke in the picture, after scanning, there are still thousands of life signals. The silver-white gun barrel of the base vehicle, which made everyone tremble with fear, has begun to accumulate energy amidst a buzzing sound. Buzz buzz. In the Valley of the End. The old man was in tatters, and he was madly pouring HP potion into his mouth. The extremely precious purple rare level rapid blood recovery potion was swallowed by him in one gulp. Looking at the doomsday scene around him in shock, at this moment, no matter how stupid he was, the old man finally realized that all of this was a huge hunting trap. Axiba. Where on earth is this bitch? Don't let me, huh? Just as he was cursing, the old man suddenly seemed to sense something and turned his head to look to the other side. A silent ray that seemed to be able to swallow up light and darkness came towards him. The dazzling light and the energy fluctuations that made the hairs on your hair instantly explode. The old man was not given any time to react. The next moment, a dark purple ray swept across the completely destroyed valley. It swallowed up the old man from the first class guild, and at the same time swallowed up the only remaining professionals from the Bangzi country who were not able to make progress. In the base. Zheng Mu picked up the cup of coffee again and took a sip. There should be 100,000, so I can let them go for a while. Chapter, 106 The hot air scorched the ground. The thick snow has already turned into large tracks of fog, completely covering the valley of the end, which has long been reduced to ruins. A figure slowly walked in the mist. Suddenly, a slight grinding sound of gravel came. There was an obvious look of surprise on Uchiha Muzin's face. It was obvious that even he had never thought that someone could survive the horrific attack just now. However, the expression on his face at this moment made the old man in front of him feel as if his eyes were splitting. Who are you? Why did you attack us? The Uchiha Muzin in front of him looked like a standard human being. Another reason that made the old man even more sure that the other party was not a monster was that he, as an S-level professional transitional master, could see through information about monsters far beyond his own level. He was very confident that if the Uchiha Muzin in front of him was a monster, it would be absolutely impossible to escape his own detection. However, his current investigation found nothing. To be able to survive such a level of attack, it seems that Lord Master is indeed wise. He cannot underestimate everyone. Uchiha Muzin murmured, and slowly pulled out his Budo Tamashii from his waist. But his eyes were focused on the broken jade pendant on the old man's chest. The old man also noticed his gaze and lowered his head slightly. When he saw the pendant on his chest, the pain in his eyes flashed away. This treasure was acquired by me after serving the previous Immortal Guild president and working for the Guild for most of my life. Although it is a red hero level piece of equipment, its value is even comparable to that of an orange legendary level treasure. Life Jade Pendant, Red Brave Level Special Equipment When equipped, it can withstand a fatal attack. After this effect is activated, the equipment will be scrapped. 
I had used all my strength before, and with the powerful strength of level IV-50, and even the use of mystical skills, I was able to barely withstand the torrent bombardment attack. However, facing the necrotic laser cannon later, he finally handed over this life-saving trump card. A monstrous murderous intention emerged from his heart, and majestic golden energy rose from behind the old man. In the blink of an eye, it turned into a glaring Vitra shadow that was ten meters tall. It is the strongest skill at level IV-50 of his profession. Pure Master's Mystery Buddha's Wrath Vitra. However, before the old man could launch his attack, the next moment a burst of divine energy, completely opposite to the divine energy emanating from him, erupted from the Uchiha Musen in front of him, the darkest and most evil breath of destruction. In the blink of an eye, the terrifying Susanu was completed in an instant. As Uchiha Musen sneered and slashed out with his sword, the terrifying sword energy wave instantly hit the Buddha's wrath King Kong in front of him. Boom! The old man's expression changed wildly, and the health bar on his panel, which represented the durability of his skill, dropped a lot in an instant. With a durability of 20W, it was only hit by Uchiha Musen once, causing a direct loss of more than 3W. However, this is not the end. You are contaminated with the breath of ruin and continue to enter a weak state. You are infected with the breath of ruin and continue to enter the poison state. You are infected with the breath of ruin and continue to enter a state of chaos. You are infected with the breath of ruin and continue to enter a state of energy out of control. You are contaminated with the breath of ruin. Debuffs were applied crazily to his body, just like the black aura that the golden light could not absorb at all, pulling at his various attributes like a body attached to bones. The old man who had just experienced a life and death disaster instantly smelled the breath of death. Shiba. Who are you? With the sound of King Kong colliding, Buddha's angry King Kong struck out in a circle with one of its arms towards the pitch-black long knife that was swung again. The old man roared repeatedly, but he already had the intention to retreat. However, Uchiha Musen's power was completely beyond his imagination. The horror of the breath of destruction was completely beyond her knowledge. In the violent collisions one after another, he could not see the durability of Susanu at all. On the contrary, the Buddha's fury King Kong he was using at this moment had reached the end of its strength. Even his own attributes have been weakened by unprecedented horror. Not even half of what it was in its heyday. Seeing that Uchiha Mukai still wanted to take action, the old man finally couldn't bear it anymore. Stop. You can't kill me. I'm from the Immortal Guild. I'm an S-level professional. If you kill me, the entire Bangzi Kingdom won't let you go. However, what responded to him was the Susanu sword that was more than 10 meters long above his head. Crack. The Golden Buddha's Wrath King Kong was instantly shattered into pieces. The old man's expression changed wildly, and golden auspicious clouds rose under his feet, trying to escape. But his eyes were inadvertently looking at each other with Uchiha Musen. Pfft. A sharp blade penetrated his chest. The old man tried hard to turn his head and look behind him, but he couldn't do it. Before the health bar is completely exhausted. The body of Uchiha Musen in sight suddenly turned into crows that screamed and flew away in all directions. Until his death, the old man never figured out who this terrifying young man in front of him was. Which force does it belong to? And why are you so frantic to kill the professionals in Bangzi country? Sharp sirens suddenly sounded from the professional management departments of major cities in Bangzi country at midnight. The loud sound directly woke up the residents living around the management department. Everyone looked at the brightly lit management department outside with a blank look on their faces, confused. However, at this moment, the person in charge of the professional management departments across the country was completely frightened. The sharp alarm sound of Didi Dip Dip was nothing to his ears at this moment. What made his expression crazy was that it was above their power monitoring light curtain. The light screen that originally displayed the numbers of awakened professionals across the country was suddenly occupied by a string of scarlet numbers. The scarlet light turned the originally blue light curtain into blood red. Tiandao alert. Faction professionals died in a single day. 43,170 people. Please be alert to the possibility of a camp war. 
Damn it, what on earth is going on? Hurry. Inform Director Lee. Something big has happened. In the highest professional management department in the capital of Bangzi Kingdom, the officer in charge of today's duty was so shocked by something he had never encountered before that he almost collapsed to the ground. He roared loudly in fear. However, before the top director arrived, anxious calls from other city professional management departments were already ringing frantically. Director Jean. What happened? Our surveillance department received an alert from heaven. Is there a war? We received a warning from heaven that more than 4300 professionals were killed in one day. Director Jean, what should we do now? Shock. The King of Bangzi has never encountered such a terrifying thing since he succeeded to the throne. The number of professional deaths in a single day exceeded 4000, which directly triggered the heavenly alarm. You know, things like heavenly alerts rarely happen even in the entire Blue Star. After all, the battles between elite professionals from various countries are all in the secret realm of different time and space, where the blood really flows. However, the war there will not trigger a Tian Dao alarm. That is to say. Check. Investigate nationwide immediately. Where did such a horrific mass death occur? I want you to give me the results of your investigation immediately. The roar of the King of Bangzi Kingdom resounded throughout the royal capital, causing violent shaking among the upper echelons of Bangzi Kingdom. The situation here was also immediately known to other countries in Blue Star. As a neighboring country, Dragon Kingdom was naturally the first to know. What did you say? More than 4300 professionals died in a single day. Are you sure it's just professionals? Not the kind mixed with civilians. When Qin Ji in the Dragon Kingdom's divine capital learned the news from above, he stayed on the spot. Okay, however, the veterans on the side burst into laughter when they heard the news. Ha ha ha. That's right. It's damn right. God can't bear to watch this. He sneaks into the boss and can still cause such horrific casualties without leaving any information about the boss. If this isn't retribution, I'll stand on my head and eat shit. Those trash who only do sneak attacks should be put to death. 40,000 is too little. They should at least get another 400,000. Looking at the veterans who are even happier than during the new year. Qin Ji ignored them and looked at General Gu Xingdong who brought the news in shock. General, this news is so crazy. What level of boss can cause more than 40 zero zero casualties in one day? And there is no information left at all, which means that no one is left alive if he encounters it. Ah! Although Gu Xingdong also had a look of relief in his eyes. But most of them are worried about the minister. The boss is like a terrifying existence arranged by heaven to wander around on the blue star. Killing any random boss means huge and terrifying rewards will come. However, these opportunities are in no way proportional to the terror of entering the boss. What if this chaotic boss moves from the Bangzi country to their dragon country? Chapter, 107 The investigation on Bangzi country's side was very rapid. In other words, the Hanching Professional Management Department received far more missing contact reports from the families of professionals today than every day before. A stream of messages directly overwhelmed the staff of the entire management department. Even outside the professional management department, more and more family members of professionals who realized that something was wrong with the situation gathered together. Noisy shouts and worried cries made the scene chaotic. Yu 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 Mai Wen En, a child who works so hard must not get into trouble. Really, it's all your fault, you damn guy. Why did you trick that kid from Mingu to find some treasure chest? You give me my son back, and you give me my son instead. Don't be anxious. Don't be anxious, everyone. Even if it's terrifying to infiltrate the boss, it's impossible for more than 40 zero zero professionals not to survive. There must be some accident at the scene. Secret realm. Maybe a secret realm has appeared. It's not necessarily that a huge secret realm has sucked so many people in. The faces of the professionals who were maintaining order were also full of worry and confusion. His eyes were constantly looking at the teleportation array in the distance that was motionless. At any time in the past, 
there would have been many people there who had obtained high-end equipment and were celebrating happily. However, today, apart from the anxiously waiting family members, no one has returned. In a daze, the professionals who maintained order couldn't help but think of the missing numbers reported these days. All of them are added up. A number appeared that gave them all chills. In just a week or so, the total number of professionals lost in the Xinyue snow region reached a terrifying 100,000. You must know that the emergence of professional 830 is not 100% guaranteed. There are 100,000 professionals, and the total number of new people in Hanqing every year is just this number. It can be said that within a week, Hanqing was directly killed by the unknown intruder boss. The key is. Everyone couldn't help but put a question mark on the possible existence of the chaotic boss. Is all this really the work of some random boss? A team of more than a dozen elite professionals entered the Star Moon Snow region and continued to investigate for a week, but no clues were found. In fact, these investigation team members did not even encounter anyone suspected of being a boss. Just when it was a mess here. Amidst the sound of the teleportation array running, dozens of figures walked out of it. The waiting family members of the missing professionals had a look of hope on their faces, but the next moment they turned into deep disappointment. Commander Chui Jingyi, what exactly happened in the snowy area? Sir, Commander, have you seen where the missing officers have gone? Commander Chui Jingyi. Chui Jingyi had a heavy look on his face. Faced with the questions from the crowd swarming around him, he just shook his head heavily. Without too many words, he quickly walked towards the city. Soon, Tai Long Guild Headquarters. When Chui Jingyi came here with dozens of members of the investigation team, he found that many people had already arrived here. When he saw one of them, Chui Jingyi's pupils shrank. Subordinate Chui Jingyi, please see your excellency general. The middle-aged man known as the general glanced at him, and then looked at Chen Doxian who was kneeling on the ground in front of him again. Those treasure chests, the red warrior level equipment, and the valley of the end were all passed on by you. President Chen Doxian, should you give us an explanation? The disappearance of 100,000 professionals. Are you secretly promoting it? This question almost scared Chen Doxian and the guild members behind him into fainting. General, General, how could this be me? You all know my information. Although I am an S-class professional, I have no combat effectiveness, and my level is only over 20. Chen Doxian was in a praying posture, his eyes filled with tears of fear. The information about the treasure chest was obtained from a secret realm that my father found in the goblin forest some time ago, but it only recorded the appearance of the treasure chest and a few sporadic coordinates. The other treasure chests we found after that were also found by ourselves. As for the Valley of the End, it also appeared in the message. I originally wanted to go there, but... Hearing the other party's explanation, and then coming over to complete the report on the interrogation of the others. The general's brow suddenly frowned deeply. Chen Doxian has certain suspicions about this matter, but the reality is also before his eyes. A small Chen Doxian is simply not enough to quietly carry out such a shocking and major case. Moreover, the young master from the Sendai Guild testified that the other party was indeed forced to stay by the people from the Sendai Guild. Even Pu Gutsan, who was competing for the vice president, quietly led his people to the Valley of the End. Now they all died there. The general looked at Chui Jingyi and others on the side. Commander Chui Jingyi, you have been investigating in the Xinyue Snow Territory for so many days, haven't you found any information about the infiltration of the boss? You know, before this, more than 4,00 people lost contact every day in the Xinyue Snow region. Did your people not bring back anything of value? Hearing this, Chui Jingyi and the people behind him broke out in cold sweat on their foreheads. Chui Jingyi felt cold all over and his body was shaking violently. But he could only grit his teeth and bow humbly. My subordinates are incompetent. And on the Bangzi country's side, the monarch personally ordered a thorough investigation into this matter. At this moment, Zheng Mu and others who were the instigators had already quickly evacuated the Xinyue snow region. In the goblin forest. In a relatively peripheral area. In the dark night, the bonfire, accompanied by the clinking of wine glasses and cheers, became the main theme of this area. 
It is patrolled and guarded by mechanical creations under Jingmu. These members of the Wheel of Truth Guild don't have to worry at all about what monsters will rush out around them. Boss, you've built a fortress. You've really built a fortress. It's a fortress. I really regret it now. Why am I not a woman? Boss, why don't you try my little daisy? Go away. Jikuan, you are so disgusting. Don't bring your dirty thoughts to our brother Jammu. Ha ha ha, Ji Kuen, even if you are a woman, you are definitely a potential customer for the medical professionals in Bangzi country. In the warm atmosphere, Zhen Mu was holding a beer glass with a smile and celebrating with the people around him. Next to him, Jiang Lan Lan was like a cute squirrel guarding her food for the winter, with her small body standing close in front of him. On the left and right sides, He Shang Yun and Lin Bingyue were also close to him. The latter even hugged one of Zheng Mu's arms and refused to let go. Any arguments or jealousies? Before Zheng Mu led them to kill 100 00 Bangzi country professionals, that was nothing. It can be said that once today's events are reported back to the Dragon Kingdom, Zheng Mu, the new star of the Dragon Kingdom, will definitely soar into the sky. Of course, once this matter is known to Bangzi country and other countries. What awaits Sheng Mu is bound to be endless spying and murderous intent. With a level of only 426, he killed hundreds of thousands of professionals in the Bangzi kingdom without anyone noticing. It will definitely be a stain that cannot be washed away in the future. Faced with such terrifying achievements and glory, Leng Bingyue and the others, who are proud and arrogant women, have no choice but to reign in their petty tempers. Snuggled tightly to Sheng Mu's side. Their current thoughts have quickly changed from competing with each other to jointly defending against foreign enemies. Didn't you see that not far away at this moment, other girls in the guild were already looking this way? Facing Zheng Mu who was chatting and laughing, making secret glances. Obviously, with the emergence of this achievement that could be recorded in history, the aura of the three of them was no longer enough to resist the strong enthusiasm of those girls. One by one, there is really a sign of incarnation as a moth. The celebration continued until almost early in the morning. Everyone finally returned to their tents one by one and fell asleep. As for Zheng Mu, he also returned to the base vehicle. However, the bold Jiang Lan Lan did not let him just relax like this. I don't know who gave the reward to whom until Zheng Mu woke up again. But it was night again. On Zheng Mu's side, under the service of Tifa and the others, while dining with Leng Bingyue, he Shan Yun and the others in the restaurant, the Red Queen walked over gracefully. Lord Master, according to your request, I have been monitoring the situation around the Xingyue mine during this period. Unfortunately, Bangzi country's investigation is very intensive, and they even have the attitude of digging three feet into the ground. Zheng Mu frowned slightly, it seemed that these little Shiba were really stimulated. However, that is an entire vein of purple rare grade metal ore. As a mechanic, he would really toss and turn if he missed it like this. On Zheng Mu's side, I almost thought about whether to change to another area of Bangzi country. When the into the boss activity is activated again. There were bursts of urgent sounds from the communicator. The person coming was Qin Ji. However, this time, when the communication on Zheng Mu's side was just connected, Qin Ji's stern voice came immediately. Get straight to the point. Where is your kid now? Hearing the decisive voice, as if they already knew something, Zheng Mu and the others looked at each other. However, before he could answer, Qin Ji's obviously anxious and angry question came over the phone. Are you in the Starmoon Snow Region? Chapter 108 Are you in the Starmoon Snow Region? Qin Ji's voice on the phone was anxious and stern. Zheng Mu sighed and nodded. Yes. It's just that we have. What? Is it really you? Did you do what happened in the Xinyue Snow Region? Southwest Military Attaché University. In Qin Ji's office, He Guang and even Vice Principal Gu Xingdong are here at this moment. He stared at Qin Ji who was on the phone, frowning. What happened recently in the Xinyue Snow Region of Bangzi Country has been under their urgent investigation, and they know almost everything. A treasure chest appears out of nowhere. 
Then there were the professionals who later swarmed into the Star Moon Snow Territory in search of treasure chests, and during this period, a large number of professionals disappeared and died every day. They are all full of weird flavors. It was as if someone was deliberately controlling all this behind the scenes, and this familiar situation of not being able to find the so-called messing into the boss made them feel inexplicably familiar. Finally, when they saw the still empty headquarters building of the Wheel of Truth Guild, everyone suddenly seemed to think of something. What? Is it really you? Is the affair over there in the Shinyue Snow region your fault? Seeing Qin Ji looking at the phone in excitement and disbelief, asking loudly, among the people present, He Guan almost gave up his legs and sat directly on the ground. Even a general like Gu Xingdong, who was used to seeing strong winds and waves, felt his heart tremble suddenly. How is he feeling at this moment? Shock. Horror. Incredible. Almost teleporting, Gu Xingdong came to Qin Ji in an instant and snatched the phone from the other party's hand. I am Gu Xingdong, Jing Mu. What happened in the Xinyue snow region in recent times are really all your fault. In the base, when they heard that the big shot Gu Xingdong was still there, Zheng Mu originally planned to show off his wits to Qin Ji, but now he was also hurriedly coughing. Ahem, General Gu, of course I didn't do this alone. Everyone in our guild was involved. However, Gu Xingdong interrupted him directly. Tell me in detail what you have done recently. The more detailed the better. Even Gu Xingdong himself didn't notice that his voice was obviously trembling at this moment. In fact, he couldn't help but be excited about this matter. That's 100,000 people. 100,000 pure professionals, all professionals above level 20. But when it comes to it, professionals in this level range are completely the elite reserves for Bangzi country to enter the secret realm of different time and space in the future. In just one week, so many professionals from Bangzi country were killed. At any time, it would definitely be a military victory. After hearing Gu Xingdong's urging, Zheng Mu did not dare to delay. After thinking about it for a while, he started talking about the Goblin Forest. When they heard that Zheng Mu and the others were angry at the injured and disabled soldiers who suffered losses on the front line, they all went out to find the bad luck of Bangzi country. Gu Xingdong was both pleased and angry. Glancing at Qin Ji and He Guang who were anxious on the side, Gu Xingdong hummed softly and turned on the speakerphone of the phone. I originally thought about cleaning up these little Shiba a little bit, taking back the Goblin Forest, and then taking the guild members to book a place here to spawn monsters, but they were much easier to deal with than we thought, so we decided to go to the Star Monthly Meeting or another vote. Hearing Jing Mu's tone of voice that didn't take Bangzi's life seriously at all, and his bandit-like remarks. The corners of Gu Xingdong's mouth raised slightly, but his eyes rolled silently. Qin Ji on the side couldn't help asking. Jing Mu, you said you killed a group of guild members from the Bangzi kingdom in the Goblin Forest. How many were killed? Who were they? Hearing this question, Zheng Mu smacked his lips and looked around casually amidst the snickers of the women on the side. Hey, it's a public monster area after all. There aren't many Shaoshiba. It's just the three second-rate guilds over there who are doing something. The total adds up to about 800. Hiss. 8000. Qin Ji's sharp exclamation directly caused Ling Bingyue and others to laugh and roll their eyes. It was obvious that they were very satisfied with the other party's reaction. Jiang Lan Lan, who had completed her complete transformation, sat directly over and placed an adoring kiss on Jing Mu's face. Jing Mu chuckled. Hearing the noise on the other side of the phone, Gu Xingdong glared at Qin Ji who was making a fuss. You already know that this guy killed 100 sticks. A mere 8 people, but such a big reaction. However, despite thinking so, Gu Xingdong's hands couldn't help but tremble. This guy is really lawless. A newcomer of more than 20 levels, leading a large group of guys who were also newcomers and could even be said to have never killed anyone, dared to attack more than 8 people, for times as many high-level professionals. Gu Xingdong grinned. He seemed to have seen that the 2,000 professionals who had been recruited had transformed from immature teenagers into battlefield elites with murderous eyes. 
On the other side of the phone, Zheng Mu continued to talk. When I heard that Zheng Mu finally controlled a gang rape and made the other party betray his father, he led a large group of people and ran under his cannon. He Guang's scalp was numb in shock. Just use the advantages of investigation and personnel command to surround and kill the lone stick. After all, Bangzi's gang has done this kind of thing before, and recently they even teamed up with Sakura Country to plot against them. However, He Guang really didn't expect that Jing Mu, a newcomer, could use such dirty tricks as stick rape so skillfully. It's not even worth asking someone to sacrifice most of his father and the guild's power. Later, when Zheng Mu said that he had used a similar method to surround and kill the sticks from the Xinyue snow region, and had killed thousands more, he was still not satisfied. Use the trophies from those professionals to make treasure chests one by one. Through the secret operation of Chindoshian, an adventure treasure hunt was launched in the Xinyue snow region. Everyone present, even Gu Xingdong, was rubbing his cheeks excitedly. Ruthless. Too cruel. The most important thing is that in order to kill more sticks, this kid really doesn't care what method he uses, and he doesn't care whether there are innocent people among the people he kills. On the phone. Zheng Mu talked about the number of missing people announced every day in Bangzi country. Zero please give me flowers. On the first day, there must have been more than 5,300 people. Because I was afraid that the attack would be too harsh at first and scare them away, I specially asked people to keep some of them away. In addition, the place where the patrol eagle placed the treasure chest was also far away from them. It's a little closer over there. With the excitement of that bastard Chindoshian, after investing some loot in the early stage, they simply forgot about missing persons. The next day I asked for a little mention. There were nearly 6,000 people. I think this number is about the same. Killing more people will affect the ability to catch big fish later. After that, it will be almost 4 to 5,000 every day, because I have the advantage of the Red Queen and Patrol Eagle, and I can carry out macro control of the number of people in the area. It can not only ensure a good harvest quantity every day, but also steadily allow more and more people to enter the Starlight Snow Territory. There were too many people coming later, so I didn't care. G. Kuen, oh no, it was Kai Shinkuen and the others. The combat power of these newcomers was a bit insufficient, so I could only plan the final push, the news of using Red Warrior level equipment. In the office, Zheng Mu's nagging voice gradually disappeared. Gu Xingdong and others were already a little numb. To be honest, when he first heard Zheng Mu say that he had killed thousands of people, he was a little worried. He was afraid that Zheng Mu's mental growth would be affected by some psychological pressure. Several times he wanted to comfort the other person and tell him some of the hateful things that the stick had done, so that the other person could alleviate the possible guilt. Who would have thought that Zheng Mu would become more and more excited as he talked? Just like the old lady who bought a lot of special products from the supermarket. General Gu, those Shaoshiba haven't discovered us yet, and they are basically investigating in the Xinyue snow region. I just thought that Guling Mountain further south in the Xinyue snow region is also their area, I. Just as a few people were digesting the huge amount of information in silence, Zheng Mu's voice, which was obviously letting himself go, came from the phone. Gu Xingdong was so frightened that he came to his senses instantly. Stop. Stop it immediately. Now, immediately. Get everyone back here with me. You kid is really becoming more and more lawless. Did you know that Bangzi country has already prepared to mobilize the protector god from the secret realm of different time and space to come back because of what you did? You kid, get back as fast as you can. Zheng Mu slapped his mouth, somewhat unwillingly. General Gu, I discovered the Xinyue snow region. If you find the lonely king of Bangzi, please stop it. Come back immediately. Listening to the hang-up sound coming from the phone, Zheng Mu took a breath. The General Gu Xingdong ordered him to go back, so his arrangements for the next game could only be put on hold temporarily. And just when Zheng Mu gathered everyone here and prepared to return. In the office of Southwest Military Attaché University. Gu Xingdong and the other three stared at each other with big eyes. Finally, Qin Ji picked up Yawazi and scratched his numb scalp. Hiss. 
This kid is really a wolf destroyer. You can't hear the slightest bit of psychological pressure on him. This special girl really doesn't regard the lives of those sticks as her life. Gu Xingdong shook his head speechlessly. This is more than just killing the wolf. In one week, more than 100 00 workers from Bangzi country were sent to be reincarnated. This is clearly the living king of Hell Wan from Bangzi kingdom. Chapter 109 Southwest Military Attaché University After it was confirmed that the instigator of the recent uproar in Bangzi Kingdom, which caused the King of Bangzi Kingdom to have nightmares and three surprises, turned out to be Zheng Mu, a newcomer who had only entered school for a month. Gu Xingdong immediately made an urgent report to the top without stopping. In the capital of the gods, there is a palace surrounded by red tile walls and blue stone roads. On both sides of a huge long table is a current military boss of the Dragon Kingdom. Except for some people who can't get away, basically most of the important generals are here today. In addition, there are several officials in Jiao. Mr. Li, whom Zheng Mu had seen before, was sitting in the middle. There is a heated discussion going on here at the moment, and the content of the discussion is about the recent intrusion of the boss from Bangzi country. Impossible. Do you know how serious the situation in the secret realm of different time and space is right now? We often have to fight more than three enemies per warrior. Right now, we are relying solely on the flesh and blood great wall built by those warriors who are absolutely loyal to the country and nation, and the ten guardian gods who can suppress the opponent. If one of us withdraws at this time, we will inevitably face a more fierce attack from the opposite side. I don't care what others say about this proposal. It is absolutely impossible for me, Lin Guanyong. A middle-aged man who seemed to be releasing the strong evil spirit of 870 from every pore in his body stood up straight, pointed at several officials in front of him and cursed loudly, with that attitude of not taking anyone seriously, but he won the nods from several generals around him. Several officials were livid and wanted to scold them, but if the target was the hawkish Lin Guanyong among the Dragon Kingdom generals in front of them, then forget it. Several people looked at the other generals. Ahem, General Lin, even the Bangzi Kingdom is preparing to use their national protector to deal with the mysterious intruder boss. Just in case, I think we should. A general with a Chinese character noticed the look of help from several officials and suddenly coughed dryly. However, before he could finish his words, Lin Guanyong slammed the table again. Go to hell. Jiang Guixing. I just have something to ask you. If you are asked to be responsible for the logistics of our warriors in the secret realm of different time and space, where will your special responsibility be? I don't expect you to provide our soldiers with the various status potions that Lao Mi has, but at least you should provide us with HP and MP recovery potions, right? UNND, our soldiers can obviously use recovery potions. The potion restores health, go up and fight those grandsons. Because of your logistical negligence. Our soldiers will fight with their lives. UTNND still have the nerve to bark at me like a dog. If you can, go and fight with me and those Japanese slaves and the country's guardian gods. Even if your special mother's head is moved, I still respect you as a man. In front of so many people, Lin Guanyong pointed his nose and scolded him. The general named Jiang Guixing was also full of grievances. At this moment, when he saw Mr. Li looking over, he immediately vomited bitterness. Mr. Li, I won't agree to this. What does it mean that we are irresponsible? At present, I can register all the lifestyle professions in Dragon Kingdom that can produce blue elite level or above props. We even started monthly military purchases, but our Dragon Kingdom lacks such mainstay life professionals. Moreover, we have been at a disadvantage in the secret realm of different time and space for several consecutive years. The probability of monsters within the territory dropping materials and equipment has also been reduced. Mr. Li, we really tried our best. Seeing Jiang Guixing's hair turning gray and looking like he was about to cry, Mr. Li also shook his head inside. But just when he was about to say something, an officer walked in quickly and whispered something in his ear. After Mr. Li nodded, Gu Xingdong walked in quickly. What surprised everyone was that his face was glowing red at this moment, as if something great and happy had happened. This kind of expression is difficult to see on the faces of everyone in the military recently. 
Huh, everyone is here, but just in time, I received the latest news here, the latest investigation progress about the attack in Bangzi country. Hearing this, several people present suddenly became nervous. Jiang Xinghua asked hurriedly. General Gu, do you know the information about the intruder boss? What level is it? Will it pose a threat to us? Gu Xingdong smiled and nodded, but then he shook his head under the blank gaze of everyone. Mr. Li was completely speechless, laughing and cursing and pointing at the other party. You guy, if you don't see how these guys are burning their butts off, then stop showing off. Gu Xingdong chuckled, then took a deep breath and cleared his throat. First of all, I have confirmed this matter. You don't have to doubt its authenticity. Although it is shocking, it is indeed true. Seeing everyone nodding, Gu Xingdong spoke. As for the identity of the trespassing boss from Bangzi country, it is true that it has been revealed, but it was not investigated by them, but by our Southwest Military Attaché University. The fact is that there is no intrusive boss at all, and everything that happens in Xinyong's snow domain, from beginning to end is man-made. Lin Guanyong was immediately stunned. Who can kill 100-00 professionals in seven days without being discovered? Even a strong man with the level of protector of the country can run away and leak his situation if he is not careful. Yeah, which country's national protector doesn't stay in the secret realm of time and space and goes to Blue Star to kill ordinary professionals from Bangsi country? Could it be those Japanese slaves from Sakura country? But aren't they allies? They're even against our people. Seeing the discussion among everyone present, Gu Xingdong looked solemn and looked seriously at GNI, who was sitting in the first seat. Mr. Li, it was not an outsider who did this, but one of our own. And you saw this person some time ago. Li Laoi was startled. He never thought that among the people he met recently, there were such fierce people. Moreover, the identity and position of each of the people he met were of considerable importance. It was absolutely impossible for them to do something like this to an ordinary professional, and end up being blamed. Gu Xingdong took a deep breath when he saw that Mr. Li had never thought of it. Mr. Li, that person is that boy Zheng. Zheng Mu. Everyone present had never heard of this name and could not imagine when such a fierce person would appear among the senior professionals of Dragon Kingdom. Lin Guanyong's expression perked up, and he instantly decided in his heart that if he had the opportunity, he must try his best to drag this fierce man into the secret military zone of different time and space. With the other party joining, they will definitely be able to share a lot of pressure. However, Mr. Li was also so shocked that he sat up straight and asked in surprise. Zheng Mu. Is that the new guy? Gu Xingdong nodded heavily zero. Seeing such a steady person like Mr. Li, everyone was shocked and gasped. He also shook his head with a wry smile. Old Li, when I heard about what happened in Bangzi country, I didn't think much about it, but that boy Zheng Mu and his gang of newcomers left school without any movement for several days, and the Xinyue Snow Territory what happened is quite similar to that of the bone-swallowing desert. Unexpectedly, I just called and asked, and I actually won. Speaking of this, Gu Xingdong slapped his thigh excitedly. On the side, Jiang Guixing frowned, General Gu, why do I listen to you? It seems that this Zheng Mu is a student of your school. How is this possible? A newcomer. Gu Xingdong interrupted and corrected him. Zheng Mu is not alone. Zheng Mu also brought the first batch of freshmen admitted to the Southwest Military Attaché this year, a total of about 2,000 people. Jiang Guixing. Do you understand what I mean? Of the two zero zero newbies who are excellent, they can only be around level 20 at most, right? Among the dead 100 zero zero stick professionals at level 20, they are the very few at the bottom. Gu Xingdong ignored everyone's doubts and took the initiative to talk about Jing Mu. When everyone knew that Jing Mu turned out to be a mechanic who created many powerful mechanical creations, they all showed surprise, and their interest became more and more intense. And when they heard that Jing Mu was actually taking the entrance examination, because he was targeted by universities such as Xingqing, they immediately challenged all the candidates except Southwest Military Attaché University. They all clapped their hands and cheered. Ha ha ha. I like this boy's temper. 
Lin Guanyong clapped his hands excitedly, but looking at his expression, there were more or less personal emotions directed at Xingqin University. And when Gu Xingdong explained the power of the base created by Zheng Mu, everyone's expressions became dull. Level 20 annihilates the IV-63 Golden Insect Mother head-on. And he also wiped out tens of thousands of insect swarms summoned by the opponent at the same time. Everyone looked at each other, are all the newcomers so fierce now? Gu Xingdong looked at Mr. Li, took a deep breath 5-1, and recounted the entire process that Xing Mu described on the phone. At the scene, even a standard military Iron Eagle like Lin Guanyong was shocked by Zheng Mu's cruelty and ruthlessness towards the enemy. Not only did he have such terrifying strength at such a young age, but without blinking an eye, he directly ordered to annihilate more than 40 00 sticks in one fell swoop. Lin Guanyong asked hurriedly. General Gu, how is that boy's condition now? I mean, have you sent anyone for psychological counseling? Gu Xingdong had a strange expression and shrugged. Huh, psychological counseling. That kid needs some fucking psychological counseling. If I hadn't forced him to come back, that kid would have led his people to fight in the Guling Mountain area. Gu Xingdong looked at everyone and sighed. To be honest, I feel like that kid, if you ask him to kill a hundred thousand chickens, he might ask you if you can finish them. If you ask him to kill a hundred thousand sticks, Kanishihachi. Gu Xingdong shook his head, you have to watch him, don't let him kill you. Seeing that even Lim Guan Yong, the representative of the hawks who always advocated toughness, had dull eyes, Gu Xingdong had one sentence hidden in his heart that he did not say out. Judging from Zheng Mu's acting style, this guy is definitely a born hawk. Chapter 110 our Southwest Military Attaché University is committed to cultivating strong men who are truly good at fighting, and behind them is our Dragon Kingdom military. So after you enter here from today, you must remember the first iron rule here. Strength is respected. Southwest Military Attaché University is divided into three campuses. You can also think of it as the third, sixth and ninth grades of Southwest Military Attaché University. The three campuses from lowest to highest are Weiguan Campus, Xiaoguan Campus, and the highest Jiangguan Community. Southwest Military Attaché University, Teleportation Array Square, Weiguan Campus. The veterans, who had been mentally frustrated and physically disabled, finally officially entered their new roles. Teacher, lecturer and instructor at Southwest Military Attaché University. According to the roster in their hands, they gathered the newcomers assigned to their names and loudly told them about the situation of Southwest Military Attaché University. Because of the big commotion Zheng Mu made during the assessment, and the permission from above to reselect the assessment institution for the second assessment. The second batch of Southwest Military Attaché University received 1.7 million freshman selections. Although it has not yet reached the maximum enrollment number during the peak period of the Southwest Military Attaché, it has already made the people in charge of the admissions office of Southwest Military Attachment University hug each other excitedly, and the grown man directly held his head and started crying. The instructors were telling some rules about the campus, but these newcomers kept looking around. Not many people. Occasionally, you can only see a few students who look like old students. When you see these newcomers, not only are they not as vicious as the outside world said, but for some reason, their eyes are still a little evasive. They all show doubtful expressions. Where is Zheng Mu? Shouldn't they enroll a month before us? I haven't seen it either, and none of the people who signed up for Southwest Military Attaché University have seen it. Logically speaking, they should be fine. Yuwa, I'm about to see my idol. Just watch, I will definitely kick that little bitch Ling Bingyue away and become brother Zheng Mu's girlfriend. Sister, you are stuck as a fan. Looking at the scene that was gradually becoming chaotic, the instructors suddenly frowned. As those who came off the battlefield, what they couldn't bear the most was this undisciplined and sloppy appearance. Just when they were ready to clean up their behavior. Behind, the huge teleportation array suddenly erupted with a dazzling white light. The next moment, densely packed figures walked out of it. Hey, I'm back. Didn't you say that you want to change places to take us to continue the sea? Don't say it, it must be an order from above. 
The boss has already sent the patrol eagle towards Guling Mountain before, but he still didn't take it back. Ha! Huh. Is this the newcomer's registration today? Amidst the discussion, the white light dissipated, and these newcomers immediately saw Zheng Mu from the crowd, whose arms were held by Ling Binyue and He Shang Yun. Those girls who originally thought about competing for Zheng Mu's girlfriend status were stunned for a moment. Then, that's He Shang Yun. No, why, she, why is she holding classmate Zheng Mu with that little bitch Ling Binky? This woman is indeed a shameless product. Humph. The girl's attention was first focused on the girls around Jing Mu. However, the boys were stunned after seeing the information about these classmates in front of them. What the hell? What did I see? Who is that person? Level 23. Hiss. These people are all above level 20, 21, 22. Look, the Kai Shinkuan who is following classmate Jing Mu, that B-level professional boy, is already IV. Why are they being upgraded so quickly? Haven't they only been here for a month? The teaching led by the instructors has already started in advance. Amid the discussion, Zheng Mu looked at the newcomers who had arrived, his eyes slightly dazed. Time really flies by. I didn't seem to do anything, and a month passed like this. If the people on the side knew what he was thinking at this moment, they would definitely spit in his face. Brother, how can you call this month of your life boring? The cancer in Weiguan campus was eliminated, and the Wheel of Truth, which had only been established for a few days, became the strongest guild in Weiguan campus. He also took them to the Bangzi country area to kill them. If you pick up anything and put it on someone else's body, it will be recorded as a video and made into a QR code and engraved on the tombstone. However, I really feel that my past month has been quite boring. Kai Shinkuan and others participated in the hunt for Shao Shiba, although the majority of the final kills were caused by the mechanical creations under Zheng Mu. But what is Zheng Mu himself doing? Make AT-800 and upgrade the opponent to AT-100. Use the skill ordinance transformation, to upgrade the combat effectiveness of these guild members under your command. Research materials-based trophies and think about possible manufacturing of mechanical creations. Then explore the mystery of life. Zheng Mu shook his head, feeling that he could not continue to degenerate like this, he should at least leave the comfortable base, take action, and become active on the battlefield. Well, it looks like I need to ask the military if they have any larger aircraft. The base vehicle is still a bit slow on the ground. By the time I arrived, the day lilies were already cold. Zheng Mu frowned in thought and walked towards the Union headquarters. The guild members behind them had no intention of communicating with these newcomers. Back when we were in the bone-swallowing desert, we were all on different sides. Now, these people have just experienced a series of bloody battles and have already completed their self-transformation, let alone these newcomers who are like hothouse flowers in front of them. Even if they were standing in front of him, they would go up and slap them twice. How could I be so stupid back then? However, they ignored these newcomers, who came together one after another as they saw that each level had improved a lot and their temperament had undergone tremendous changes. Classmates, what did you go out to do? Can you tell me? Classmates, have you started teaching skills one month in advance? Who is the instructor you assigned? Classmate. Questions came one after another. The fear and calculation of being surpassed and distanced from others were clearly evident on the faces of these people. Now, somehow, they could see through it at a glance. Hang Shanha ignored these people and followed Zheng Mu directly towards the Union headquarters. However, at this time, a small hand suddenly placed on his shoulder. This classmate, you. The sweet voice came, and Hang Shanha frowned and turned his head slightly. The light bursting out of his eyes and the evil aura brought by the twenty-man killing match matched his professional image of carrying a coffin. The sweet girl's smile instantly froze in place. Like a beautiful flower blooming in the sun, the picture suddenly turned into black and white. What? The word calm came out of Hang Shanha's mouth. But the cold wind was like a steel knife cutting through the neck of the girl in front of her, making her feel like she had fallen into an ice cave. I don't know why, but the other party clearly didn't yell at me to kill him. 
Those eyes that seemed to be looking at a dead person instantly caused goosebumps all over her body. The girl here was so frightened that she stood on the spot, while there was a quarrel among the crowd on the other side. Why are you so cruel? We just asked you some things, what are you doing? A newly registered boy complained with an ugly face. The two companions on the side felt the sight of them like steel knives, and they suddenly swallowed nervously. The young man who was stopped frowned, he was just thinking about something. It was about the use of skills during combat. He found that the skills of professionals were not just released and left alone. The timing of skill release is controlled, as well as the difference in experience. Between people of the same level and the same profession, the combat power they unleash may be vastly different. During this period of fighting, he discovered that when 087's classmates with the same level and occupation as him released the same skills, they would often release them faster than him. And these were things he hadn't noticed before. Just as he was constantly simulating the techniques for releasing the skills in his mind, he was stopped by several people in front of him. The first instinctive reaction was to reveal a fierce evil aura. But it directly scared these people. And those who also saw this scene were the instructors and lecturers present. They felt the evil spirit emanating from these people, and they all frowned. They are all veterans, so naturally they know very well what is going on with this seemingly uncontrollable evil spirit. New recruits go through a lot of life and death fights in a very short period of time on the battlefield. Such evil spirits will naturally appear. And when these recruits grow up for a period of time, this evil spirit will naturally converge, and when fighting the enemy, their own aura will explode. However, these situations are limited to new recruits. What have these new recruits experienced now? Do so many of them exude an overwhelming evil spirit? Zheng Mu, who was walking in front, turned around slightly when he heard the movement behind him. Don't cause trouble, go back and calm down. With a simple sentence, the originally awkward atmosphere was instantly resolved. The members of the Wheel of Truth Guild who frowned and looked at these newcomers all responded in unison. Then he left the teleportation square under the confused gaze of everyone. Several veterans looked at their backs and gathered together. Third brother, did you see what happened just now? The aura on those boys just now is definitely the evil aura that can only be obtained by killing people, and the amount is not low. Yes, what on earth have these boys been doing these days? Damn it! Several people were talking quietly, but they didn't notice at all that the pupils of the newcomers standing nearby shrank. They looked at each other and saw a strong look of terror in each other's eyes. Kill. And killed many people. Chapter, 11. Ignore these newcomers and see what the members of the Wheel of Truth Guild will react after seeing a drastic change in temperament. At this moment, the news of Zheng Mu's return with someone had just come out. Qin Ji immediately came over anxiously. Did you really do that thing? On the top floor of the guild headquarters, Qin Ji Gang asked this question again as soon as he came up. Zheng Mu rolled his eyes and gently took off his coat from behind. General Qin, can I still joke about this kind of thing? Isn't it just to kill a group of Shao Shiba from the Bangzi Kingdom? As for making such a fuss, Zheng Mu really thinks this matter is no big deal. Blue Star is now a world of professionals. Everyone is either dead or alive. Isn't it normal for people to be dead? However, it is precisely the attitude of not being indebted to the lives of 100 00 people from beginning to end that makes Qin Ji, who has been in the army for many years and participated in many large and small battles, feel a little scared. He once regarded himself as a tough military hawk. But now compared with Zheng Mu in front of me, what kind of hawk am I? Am I not a proper dove of peace? Qin Ji didn't want to say anything anymore. Sigh. Mr. Li wants to see you, and he is accompanied by some other generals and senior officials of our Dragon Kingdom. Night. The freshmen who have just arrived have all been assigned class instructors and dormitories, and are getting familiar with the environment of Weiguan campus. They are also asking members of the Path of Truth Guild about recent events. However, Zheng Mu is under the leadership of Qin Ji at this moment. Arriving at a palace in the core area of the Divine Capital. And here, Zheng Mu also saw Mr. Li, whom he had met once before. 
It's just that Mr. Li is obviously more majestic now than before. However, after seeing Xing Mu, this majesty immediately disappeared and turned into kindness. Huh, you kid really can't calm down. In less than a month, you have done such a big thing again. Old man, I am even scared by you. Mr. Li said with a smile, such a close tone, as if he was an elder or a junior, which made some senior officials present have their eyes wandering around Jing Mu's body. Obviously, Mr. Li's thoughts about Jing Mu are not just about his love for talents. Jing Mu is currently wearing a cadet general uniform from the Southwest Military Attaché University. After absorbing the T-100, he has become taller and taller, making him look quite tough as a soldier at the moment. Coupled with the 10W Bangsi Country Professionals trap killing record, he now has some maturity and ruthlessness of a general. First, he solemnly saluted Mr. Li with a standard military salute, and then saluted others. Zheng Mu relaxed slightly, his face showing the innocence and innocence that a junior should have. Mr. Li, you can't say that. I haven't done anything. I was still reflecting on myself before. In the last month after I enrolled in school, I slacked off a lot. I did nothing every day and my level didn't improve much. Pft, cough, cough, cough. Jiang Guixing was drinking water and was so shocked that he was choked by such shameless words. While wiping the water stains on his body in embarrassment, he stared at Jing Mu. You kid killed 100 workers from the country in one week, and you still have nothing to do. Don't be so innocent, okay? We are all our own people here. Mr. Li also shook his head and smiled bitterly, Zheng Mu is good at everything, but his character is shameless, and it seems that this guy is proud of being shameless. But it seems that, to a certain extent, his shameless character is indeed very suitable for the needs of the Dragon Kingdom in the future. The official sitting opposite Jiang Guixing showed some dissatisfaction on his face. Classmate Zheng Mu, do you know how much pressure this thing you have done will bring to the Dragon Kingdom? 100,000 people. Kill them if you want. Do you know that once this matter is leaked, that stick will between the country and us, there will inevitably be a war between the country of heaven and the country. Not only a hundred thousand people will die by then. Even the foundation built by generations of ancestors of our dragon kingdom will be burned to the ground in our generation. Such harsh words caused some people present to frown. Lin Guanyong also frowned after hearing this but he had to say that once this matter broke out, there would really be a possibility of a national war. After all, there were 100 people. On Blue Star, how many years has it been since there has been such a large-scale, short-term professional death incident? This incident is no different from Zheng Mu sitting on the head of the King of Bangzi and shitting. With Bangzi's low self-esteem and arrogant character, the whole country will inevitably start a national war craze. However, everyone once again underestimated Zheng Mu's shamelessness. I saw him looking at the official with a strange expression and speaking to him. Then he spread his hands. Then just ask people to arrest the members of our Wheel of Truth Guild. After all, each of them has the lives of at least ten Bangzi country professionals. As for me, Zheng Mu looked innocent, the ones who killed them were mechanical creations. What does it have to do with my mechanic, Zheng Mu? Mr. Li was stunned. Jiang Guixing, who was holding the water glass, was stunned. Lin Guanyong's eyes almost popped out, and he opened his mouth wide, not knowing what to say. Standing behind Jing Mu, Qin Ji, who had been silent, slowly turned his head to the side. The scene fell into a brief silence, stared at by pairs of eyes that seemed to be looking at something rare in the world, but there was nothing unnatural on Jing Mu's face. He even looked at the senior official very calmly. You didn't you make those mechanical creations? The senior official's expression became a little stiff, and he was already roaring in his heart. Should such a shameless person really wear a military uniform? Shouldn't this be the most shameless of officials? Zheng Mu slapped his mouth. I created it, but sir, I am just a pitiful, weak and helpless person. Now I am only in 426 mechanic. I cannot control such a powerful mechanical creation, and it is out of control. Zheng Mu spread her little hands again. That makes sense, right? Pfft. This time, Mr. Li burst out laughing, 
waving his hands with a somewhat gaffle smile. The wrinkles on the old face seemed to have loosened a lot, and he looked at Gu Xingdong who was also holding back a smile. Ha ha ha, Xingdong, you said at the time that this kid should belong to your military by birth. Now look at it, ha ha ha, I think you are so shameless towards this kid. Among Lao Xiang and his group, you can also thrive. Ha ha ha. Gu Xingdong burst into laughter, and the officials who had spoken before also shook their heads helplessly. But let's not talk about it, this shameless energy really has some essence. Seeing that the atmosphere at the scene had finally relaxed a little, Mr. Li also smiled and waved his hand, looking at Ching Mu. Okay, let's stop talking about such nonsense. Don't say that our Dragon Kingdom will not betray its own soldiers. With your potential, even if a national war begins, our Dragon Kingdom will not be afraid. The domineering tone of these words was revealed, and at the same time, Ji Ho's eyes swept over several people present very sternly. The flavor of warning can be felt by everyone. Suddenly, not to mention Jiang Guixing, even Lin Guanyong, who was also not small in the background, could not help but envy Zheng Mu at this moment. Their old man is also on the same level as Mr. Li, but even when he joined the army, he did not receive such a degree of attention. With Mr. Li's words, as long as Zheng Mu doesn't bring himself down, he will do anything to betray the country. Anyone who threatens to hand over Zheng Mu will be directly punished as treason. Proper Golden Body Protection However, this kid does have this strength. Seeing that these guys had stopped, Mr. Li looked at Zheng Mu again. The Southwest Military Attaché University is about to start classes recently. Those veterans who have retired from the front line include all types of professions. Although you are a mechanic, you still have a lot to learn. On the battlefield, combat experience is more valuable than level. Their teachings can help you avoid many detours and grow up as quickly as possible. Li Laoshu babbled, like a parent sending his children to the school gate. However, Zheng Mu paused and raised his head. Well, Mr. Li, there is something I hope you can promise me. Mr. Li was stunned for a moment, waiting for his next words. Zheng Mu immediately clicked on the watch on his wrist, and the next moment a Wang Li Zhao, sand table light screen in the Xinyue snow land appeared in front of everyone, it was extremely clear. Before everyone could be surprised by the mechanic's ability, Zheng Mu pointed at one of the hills. Mr. Li, I want to continue to carry out operations against the Star Moon Snow region and control the Star Moon Snow region in our own hands. What? As soon as these words came out, before Zheng Mu could finish speaking, there was a burst of exclamations around him. Mr. Li's face instantly became serious. Zheng Xiaozi, you have to know that if we take action at this time, it is no different from taking the initiative to provoke. At this time, it will inevitably cause a strong backlash from Bangzi country. Tell me your reasons. Old man, let me first listen to your reasons for taking over the Star Moon Snow region. If it is a pure leveling place, I think taking down the goblin forest is enough. Zheng Mu nodded, and as his hands slid through the light screen, a marked red snow mountain was enlarged. I received a prop that recorded information in the snowy area. Based on the information above and the investigation of the mechanical creations under my command, here. There is a purple rare star moon metal vein. And the reserves are not small. As soon as these words came out, the eyes of several officials who had originally frowned and planned to directly object suddenly burst into unimaginable fire. Jiang Guixing, who was in charge of military logistics, was so excited that he suddenly stood up. Real. Chapter 112. Purple Rare Mineral Vein. When Zheng Mu said this, he could instantly feel that the atmosphere in the hall suddenly became solemn, as if looking around, everyone turned into a volcano ready to erupt. Real. When Jiang Guixing stood up excitedly and grabbed Zheng Mu's arm, all the eyes focused on Zheng Mu became hot. Several officials also put their hands on the table in front of them, sitting upright and staring at Jing Mu. Classmate Jing Mu, you may not know now that in the entire Dragon Kingdom, there are only about 20 mineable purple rare resource areas provided by heaven, and there are only three metal veins among them. So you should know now how valuable a purple rare grade metal vein is to us, right? You can't just joke about this kind of thing. Jing Mu knew that purple rare grade metal ore was scarce, 
but he really didn't know that it was so scarce. Nod solemnly. I have sent mechanical creations to conduct on-site investigation. It is indeed a purple rare-grade metal vein, located in this snow-capped mountain. At this time, as soon as Jing Mu finished speaking, Lin Guanyong immediately started to slap the case. It's done. Mr. Li, since there is really a purple rare-level metal vein, we must not let it go. As long as the Xingyu S snow region is under our control, we will not only have another leveling place in Blue Star, but also there are ways to create more advanced equipment. This will definitely increase the combat effectiveness of our warriors in the secret realm of different time and space. As Lin Guanyong spoke, he seemed to have thought of something and looked hesitantly at Cheng Mu aside. However, Gu Xingdong 450 waved his hand lightly. It doesn't matter, the kid from the secret realm of different time and space already knows about it, and there is nothing to hide from him. Hearing this, the smile on Lin Guanyong's face grew stronger. Mr. Li also pondered and nodded. There was no reason to continue before. In order to ensure that Jing Mu was not exposed, he naturally chose to go crazy in Bangzi country as much as possible. Keep a low profile. But the situation is different now. A purple rare level metal vein means that tens of thousands of purple rare level equipment and weapons can increase the combat effectiveness of the warriors in the secret realm of time and space by 10%. If they don't take it, and the Bangzi kingdom finds this mineral vein in the future, their dragon kingdom will definitely be the first to suffer. This wave is called. God doesn't give you what you want, but you take the blame for it. Mr. Lee looked at the people present with the determination of a superior in his eyes. What made Jing Mu happy was that everyone present, even the civil servants, nodded heavily, without any intention of holding back. We must capture this Xing Yue metal vein, so here comes the problem. Are we directly declaring war? If we declare war, what reason would we use to declare war? The leading civil servant frowned slightly and asked the next question. Zheng Mu originally had no intention of continuing to speak. After all, everyone present was a big boss, and he was just a little shrimp, so it was hard for him to interrupt. However, after waiting for a long time, everyone frowned. From time to time they whispered to each other and discussed in a low voice. But no one came up with a solution for a long time. Zheng Mu was suddenly at a loss. Um, Mr. Li, sirs, generals, is it difficult to find a reason for declaring war? When everyone heard Zheng Mu's question, they all turned to look at him, only to see that he looked puzzled and looked like he was holding something back and was not happy. Mr. Li chuckled. Oh. It seems like you have another idea. Zheng Mu was a little embarrassed, but he still scratched his head, coughed dryly, and expressed his thoughts. It's just a reason to declare war. Can't we just start from the beginning? Directly inform the Bangzi kingdom that an outstanding professional from our dragon kingdom has been lost in the Star Moon snowy territory. We request to send troops to investigate. Look at the expressions on everyone's face as if they are looking at some kind of monster. Zheng Mu gritted his teeth, at worst, I'll let a few S-level professionals from our guild go, Sang Luo, Gu Ming, He Shang Yun, and Jiang Lan Lan. By the way, I heard that Jiang Lan Lan's family is not simple. Let her hiding for a while. Several of our S-class professionals have disappeared in the Star Moon Snow region, and among them are descendants of high-ranking officials. Is it normal for us to send troops to search? Zheng Mu said, feeling like he had stepped on his face. As long as you have enough strength, you can do things without any scruples. He talked about his thoughts excitedly, but he didn't notice at all that the people who were looking at him were silently looking at Jiang Guixing who was sitting there with a wonderful expression. Jiang Guixing was holding the water glass, the smile on his face had stiffened. The water in the cup was finished, otherwise he would definitely splash the kid in the face when he looked at Jing Mu who was beaming with joy. For nothing else. The Jiang Lan Lan that Jing Mu mentioned was clearly his family member. To be precise, she is Jiang Guixing's sister, the daughter of the old man of the Jiang family, the treasure he holds in his hands. As a result, Zheng Mu directly told Jiang Lan Lan to disappear. But fortunately, Zheng Mu said that Jiang Lan Lan should hide for a while. It doesn't mean that the other party should really go to the Star Moon Snow region. Ha! Huh. Is there anything wrong with what I said? 
After Zheng Mu finished speaking his thoughts, he looked at the people with strange expressions and asked with some confusion. But unexpectedly, Jiang Guixing slowly put down the water glass in his hand. He asked with a smile. Classmate Jing Mu, it sounds like you have a good relationship with the classmates you just mentioned. What is the relationship between this classmate Jiang Lanlan and you? It's always hard to choose people casually for such a big plan, isn't it? Zheng Mu nodded, act, it's okay, Talanlan is my girlfriend. Jiang Guixing's expression froze, as if he had heard the old man's angry roar spreading throughout the Jiang family mansion in the near future. But unexpectedly, at this time Gu Xingdong asked with a surprised look on his face. I heard from Xiao Qin that the childhood sweetheart you grew up with is your girlfriend. Suddenly, even Mr. Li, who was holding a cup and drinking tea, paused slightly and pricked up his ears without any trace. Zheng Mu nodded again. Yes, Lang Binyue is also my girlfriend. Damn it! Qin Ji lowered his head at this moment and wanted to cover his ears. Gu Xingdong also instantly realized how talkative he had been, and hurriedly stood up to make amends. However, at this time, Zheng Mu spoke shockingly again. In addition, He Shang Yun is also my girlfriend. The four of us are in a free relationship. Mr. Li secretly gave a thumbs up in his heart, it's true that a hero comes from a boy. Several civil servants present also coughed a few times in embarrassment. As they lowered their heads, they began to convey their self-perceptions about this big melon to each other. As for Jiang Guixing, Lin Guanyong, who had pointed at his nose and spat wildly before, burst into laughter and put his hand directly on his shoulder. Ha ha ha, I didn't expect General Jiang and our classmate Jing Mu to have such a relationship, ha ha ha. Jiang Guixing's eyes were filled with blazing anger, and he gritted his teeth and stared at the dull-looking Jing Mu in front of him. Lin Guanyong on the side introduced Cheng Mu directly with a smile. What are you doing standing still? Our Xinghua is the eldest brother of one of your girlfriends, classmate Jiang Lanlan. Why don't you call me brother-in-law? My family, I announced in front of my girlfriend's brother that I have three girlfriends. How can we make him not only not angry, but also smile and wish our family a for a happy life? Waiting online, it's quite urgent. Jiang Guixing's hands were squeezing loudly. If the situation hadn't been right at this moment, he would probably have given Zheng Mu a thumbs up. In the end, Mr. Li coughed and hurriedly stopped the situation from getting worse. Ahem, let young people handle their own affairs. What matters most to us right now is state affairs what do you think of the reasons given by classmate Zheng Mu? Only then did everyone start thinking. However, after thinking about it, everyone's expressions became weird again. Jiang Guixing even glanced at Jing Mu, who was standing aside awkwardly, and snorted coldly. He is indeed a shameless person. Jing Mu smiled. My dad once told me that when faced with other people's accusations and you can't defend yourself, just laugh. Laughter can solve all problems. He smiled stiffly and glanced slightly behind him. Qin Ji, this guy, it's his fault that he still regards the other person as his guide and good brother. This guy didn't even tell him the identities of these people in advance. However, unexpectedly, it was the civil servants present who were the first to nod in agreement with Cheng Mu's proposal. There is a way. The Star Moon Snow region is originally an area of Bangzi country. This fact cannot be refuted. We are indeed playing the role of bandits this time. What we want is the Star Moon Snow region and the mineral veins. As for face and so on. Don't think about it for now. Zheng Mu immediately nodded hurriedly, that's right. If you want to save face and suffer hardship, you need to be even more shameless than them to deal with these shameless guys like Bangzi. However, the civil servant then pondered again. But there is another problem. With this excuse, we can bravely break into the Star Moon Snow territory. Bangzi country will never dare to start a national war immediately, but after all, we want to exploit the mineral veins there for a long time. Everyone's eyes once again turned to the most shameless guy in the room. BX. Looking at everyone's gaze, Zheng Mu swallowed his saliva and asked tentatively. Then why don't we conduct practical training for new professionals in the Xinyue snow region? Training for a year and a half. 
Hearing this, everyone looked at each other and looked sympathetically at Jiang Guixing, who looked depressed. This boy is really shameless. Maybe this time, the Jiang family will lose both his wife and the army with this boy. Chapter 113 What happened after this meeting is unknown to Zheng Mu. After he once again made a shameless speech, the detailed arrangements that followed were beyond the knowledge of a little shrimp like him. After Gu Xingdong's eyes signaled, he was taken to a side hall by Qin Ji. The green grass surrounding the quiet lake and the elegant pavilions gave Zheng Mu the illusion that he had traveled to ancient times. However, Zheng Mu had no time to appreciate this beautiful oriental night view. NND, I'm afraid we're going to be in trouble now. That little girl Jiang Lan Lan is so awesome at home. The person in charge of the logistics of the entire secret realm military region is actually his genius. Zheng Mu pinched his teeth and felt a soreness in his head. Obviously, this matter cannot be exposed so easily. The Jiang family will definitely look for him in the future. Maybe it will be like the plot in those bloody dramas in the previous life. Push a card in front of yourself and let yourself give up other women and choose to get married or something. Or just get out of here. Of course, the latter seems unlikely to Zheng Mu. With his current record and potential, no matter how good the Jiang family is, such a thing will not happen to both of them. And kicked himself away. The most likely thing is to directly launch various identity relationships at the speed of light and directly settle the matter between the two. TSK, 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 why is this so bloody? Zheng Mu murmured in distress, but Qin Ji on the side curled his lips. I can't take care of my third leg well, and now I'm in trouble. I can only say that it's my own fault. However, despite what he was thinking in his heart, the envy on his face could not be concealed. Looking at the flowers surrounding Zheng Mu, Qin Ji couldn't help but secretly doubt that he had made the wrong mistake back then and made a vow that if the country is not in peace, there will be no family. Zheng Mu didn't know that Qin Ji beside him had turned into a lemon monster at this moment. After thinking for a while and not coming up with a clue, I could only choose soldiers to cover up the water and the earth. Looking at Qin Ji aside, he remembered another thing today. General Qin, if I remember correctly, our country's military seems to have issued a notice before. If it can kill S-level and S-level professionals from other countries, it can make a request to the country as appropriate, right? Qin Ji was stunned and nodded. Then, with a flash of light, a heavy object fell to the ground with a thud. His eyes almost popped out of his head in shock. Damn it! Your mother-in-law is still carrying a corpse with you. Qin Ji swore directly and looked around in panic. Where is this place? It's not an exaggeration to say it's the center of the Dragon Kingdom. How dare you bring out a corpse here? Isn't this a special mother's attempt to commit suicide? And just after Zheng Mu took out the body, his body was suddenly startled. Instinctively, he looked around with vigilance, but saw no one. But the feeling of being stared at was so clear, and for just a moment, a slight chill ran down his back. Fortunately, these eyes only looked away after staring at him for a while. When the feeling of being watched and warned disappeared, a slight cold sweat broke out on Zheng Mu's forehead. However, Qin Ji was more nervous than him, gritting his teeth. You kid, if you come here again, you should ask me first before you do anything. Damn it, you scared me to death. Qin Ji said, wiping his forehead with his sleeve. The sweat that came out was much more embarrassing than Zheng Mu's. Zheng Mu did not ask who the source of those glances just now was. This question was in vain. As the core area of the Dragon Kingdom Divine Capital, it would not be protected by some mysterious and powerful force. That's really ridiculous. At this time, Qin Ji finally looked at the corpse on the ground, an old man. Although the corpse was well preserved, the wounds on it were very terrifying, except for the large and small scratches on the body. The fatal injury came from a penetrating wound to the chest and heart. Qin Ji only thought for a few seconds and immediately recognized the man's identity. This old guy is an old man from the Fairy Generation Guild, the first class guild in Bangzi country. Wu Shitong, the S-level master of transitional industry, is an all-round professional who not only has strong frontal combat power, 
but also can buff and heal his teammates. Having said this, Qin Ji turned to look at Jing Mu again and his eyes became misty. This old guy is at level IV 50, and because of the special nature of his profession, even if I am over level 60, I have to make arrangements to take him down. How did you do it? Jing Mu chuckled but didn't say anything clearly. But Qin Ji immediately thought of the terrifying mechanical creation of Wang Hai in the dual field. He took a deep breath and took a deep look at Jing Mu. Qin Ji suppressed the shock in his heart and nodded. The military has indeed issued that notice. S-class professionals, and S-class professionals like Wu Shitong. If you have any requests, you can tell me directly. I will report it to General Gu. However, as soon as he finished speaking, a voice came from the other side. If you have anything to say, just tell me. The two turned around and saw that it was Gu Xingdong and Mr. Li. Zheng Mu glanced behind the two of them uncertainly, and Mr. Li suddenly laughed and cursed. Well, you were so bold when you hooked up with the daughter of the Jiang family, and you dared to openly say that you have three girlfriends in public, you kid. At this point, Mr. Li didn't want to comment. Zheng Mu could only smile awkwardly. At this time, Gu Xingdong looked at the corpse lying on the ground, took a deep breath, and seemed to sigh. This old guy Wu Shitong definitely had a chance to become a being at the level of the protector of the Bangzi kingdom. It's a pity that an oath ruined his life. He could stand up and be a man, but he became a slave to the whole family of immortal dynasty. Gu Xingdong said this with a look of disdain on his face. Then he looked at Zheng Mu. If you have any requests, please tell me. Oh, if you want us to help you solve the Jiang family's problems, then you don't have to say anything. Mr. Jiang, let alone me, Mr. Li can help you. You. Hearing this, Mr. Li also nodded with a smile, seemingly happy to watch the next drama. This left Zheng Mu speechless. After all, they are all big shots, so why do they like to eat melons so much? He sighed helplessly. I'll go back and take care of that kid from the Jiang family. I'm talking about another thing. I hope to be able to pick out some weapons and equipment that were sealed up in the army back then. As soon as these words came out, several people immediately thought of the mechanical creation base vehicle that Jing Mu had built. But they already knew it. Zero please give me flowers. That thing is what Jing Mu used. It was built using an all-steel villa and an armored command vehicle that had been out of use for decades. Gu Xingdong's eyes lit up. Have you got any new ideas? Hey, the drawings of mechanical creations have been around for many years. There are so many mechanics and no one can come up with blueprints approved by heaven. Only you, renting machines to create one after another. Gu Xingdong immediately agreed to Zheng Mu's request. Anyway, they are all things that cannot be used in the secret realm of different time and space, and they will not feel bad even if they are all destroyed. Without even mentioning money or anything, Zheng Mu was directly given the authority to transfer. Looking at Gu Xingdong, who directly got himself a director position in the military logistics department after making a phone call, the smile on Zheng Mu's face became more intense. Rubbing his hands together, he continued with some anticipation. Well, there is another one. The S-class space inspector Chen Doxian who was controlled by me and whom I reported to you before, General, is alive and well, but as long as you need it, General, I can commit suicide directly. Stop it, stop it. Gu Xingdong looked helplessly at Jing Mu, who looked greedy for money, and waved his hand. Let that boy Chen Doxian keep him. As long as an S-class professional can lurk well, he will definitely be a high-ranking member of the Bangzi kingdom in the future. You boy, just tell me your request. Zheng Mu chuckled. General, you think I have done a great job this time, right? Can you let me pick some red hero level materials from the treasure house of the resource management office? I don't want much, just give me 70 or 80 pieces. That purple rare grade metal vein is definitely worth the price. Hearing Jing Mu ask for 70 or 80 red warrior level materials, Gu Xingdong was ready to refuse on the spot without even thinking about it. He took so many high level materials from the treasure house at once, even if they were at the level of the protector of the country. The presence. That's quite rare too. 
However, the second half of Zheng Mu's words directly blocked the words of rejection that were on his lips. That's right. Not to mention the record of the 100 00 strong Bangzi country professional, the purple rare star moon metal veins can definitely easily surpass the hundreds or even thousands of red brave level materials. Seeing Gu Xingdong hesitate, Mr. Li on the side smiled and nodded directly. Isn't it just dozens of red hero level materials? I'll collect them all for you, old man, common people. Zheng Mu's eyes widened and he almost knelt down in front of Mr. Li on the spot. But he was shocked by the other party's next words. You can take the documents later and go to your brother-in-law to collect them. These guys really like to eat melons. Zheng Mu's loveless expression made everyone laugh. They were all big guys, but they were quite interested in teasing this little shrimp like him. Zheng Mu looked at the documents that Mr. Li quickly sent. Looking at the red free choice at your discretion above, my eyes suddenly turned red. Looking up at Mr. Li who was smiling, his meaning was obvious. If you have the ability, you can empty out all the materials in the entire treasure house. The corners of Zheng Mu's mouth twitched twice. Oh shit. Don't fight over the steamed buns over the breath. Mr. Li, I hope that after some time, you can still smile like an ordinary person. Chapter, 114 Looking at Zheng Mu's back, it seemed as if he was suddenly ignited with an inexplicable fighting spirit. Gu Xingdong's original expression of gloating about his misfortune turned slightly solid. Well, Mr. Li, this kid shouldn't do anything outrageous again, right? Mr. Li rolled his eyes. This kid just received some red hero level materials before and built such a terrifying mechanical creation, and yet, he dared to go to Bangzi country to make such a big noise. Mr. Li looked at Gu Xingdong with a look of unkindness on his face. Tell me, if I really give him dozens of pieces of red warrior level equipment, will this guy directly produce a large number of powerful mechanical creations and capture the king of Bangzi country? This. Gu Xingdong wanted to shake his head and say it was impossible, but when he thought of Zheng Mu refreshing their knowledge again and again, he couldn't help but fell silent. Mr. Li looked at the direction Zheng Mu left and sighed. His level is still a bit low, and his character still needs to be sharpened a little more. It's absolutely impossible for old man Jiang to let him get the eastern partner he wants so easily. This guy can produce five or six pieces of materials, so two, one, three is pretty good. At this moment, Zheng Mu didn't know that Mr. Li, whom he respected behind him, was already playing dirty tricks with him. Just as he walked out of the Shindu Center with great momentum, he saw Jiang Guixing at the gate, who had obviously been waiting for a long time. Seeing Zheng Mu coming out at this moment, Jiang Guixing showed a dangerous smile on his face, stubbed out the cigarette but in his hand and threw it into the trash can nearby. Walking towards Zheng Mu step by step. Boy, I have to say that you are really brave, but your character is worthy of some discussion. Grandma's fault. You slept with a girl from my Jiang family, and you still dare to ride on three different boats. Today's bitter meal is your appetizer. As Jiang Guixing spoke, he raised his fist and hit Zheng Mu in the face. However, just when the fist was about to have an intimate interaction with his handsome face, Zheng Mu's plain voice directly stopped Jiang Guixing's movements. Do you believe that as long as I make a phone call, Lan Lan will immediately help me say this? Jiang Guixing. Damn it! How the hell can you be so shameless? I'm her brother. Do you think Lan Lan believes in me or you? Zheng Mu smiled slightly, I am her brother Mu. Do you think Lan Lan believes in me or you? This tone was so confident that Jiang Guixing was stunned. What kind of capital does this guy have that allows his own sister to support him so much even though he has built three ships openly? Jiang Guixing didn't want to believe it, but when he thought of his sister's character since childhood. Maybe, it's really possible what the hell. Looking at Jing Mu with a victorious smile on his face, Jiang Guixing wanted to smash his face to pieces, but at this moment he had to worry about his sister's feelings. But at this moment, Jing Mu hugged his shoulders with a smile. General Jiang, we don't need to be so tense. There are some things we can talk about. However, Jiang Guixing snorted coldly, shook his shoulders, and instantly bounced Jing Mu away. Humph. 
don't think that you can get through the Chiang family just by taking control of that little girl Lan Lan. Our old man will know about this soon. By then, he will be a man who likes to cut through troubles with a quick knife. Born. Speaking of the old man of the Jiang family, Jiang Guixing had an expression of both admiration and fear on his face. However, when Zheng Mu heard this, the smile on his face became more intense. Ha, huh, Mr. Jiang has devoted his whole life to the Dragon Kingdom, so why would he yell at me, a junior, to kill him because of this little thing? Lan Lan and I are all consensual. Seeing that the other party had a cold face and was about to leave. Zheng Mu stopped him in a hurry. General Jiang, don't leave in a hurry. I have something else to do to get rid of you. Zheng Mu said and took out the documents given by Mr. Li. When Jiang Guixing saw the red words you can choose freely as you see fit on it, a slight sneer curled up at the corner of his mouth. He slapped the document in his hand back into Zheng Mu's hand. A scoff. It's at your discretion. Our logistic side is under a lot of pressure right now, so you have to wait for a while. As he spoke, he patted Zheng Mu on the shoulder with a joking look on his face, don't worry, the Dragon Kingdom will not let anyone who has contributed to the country down. However, when Zheng Mu saw the other party's obvious intention to avenge himself, the smile on his face did not change at all. He nodded and put away the documents in his hands. That's it, okay, then I'll wait a moment. By the way, I recently developed a new mechanical creation. I wonder if General Jiang is interested in taking a look. He said quietly in the other person's ear. It will definitely surprise you. Jiang Guixing looked at Zheng Mu who was heading towards the Southwest Military Attachment University campus first. He narrowed his eyes, pondered for a moment, and then followed him. Southwest Military Attaché University, Weiguan Campus. When Zheng Mu and the others came back, it was already three or four in the morning. Originally, Jiang Guixing thought the campus would be very deserted. However, when he saw the brightly lit and bustling Wheel of Truth headquarters building, he was stunned. Later, after following Zheng Mu into the building, as soon as he was on the first floor, he was shocked and speechless by the scene in front of him. Storage Backpack Or a Storage Backpack Looking around, the huge first floor hall was completely occupied by piles of storage backpacks, and there was not even a place to stand. In addition to these, a person who is obviously a member of the guild is doing sorting work here. Take out all the items in the storage backpack, and then put them into the sorted storage backpack according to materials, equipment, consumables, etc. And pile them on the other side. Just when Jiang Guixing was stunned, a clear voice came. Brother? Why are you here? Seeing the familiar figure running over like an elf, Jiang Guixing opened his mouth, but noticed the subtle changes in Jiang Lanlin's eyebrows. A pair of hands couldn't help but wipe it. Zheng Mu smiled slightly and stopped the other party's shoulder. Lan Lan, you're busy here first. I'll go up and have something to do with my uncle. Jiang Guixing's mouth twitched when he heard Zheng Mu's brother, but he couldn't get angry in front of his sister. Just pretend you didn't hear it. But Jiang Lan Lan clearly realized something and looked at Zheng Mu worriedly. After the latter comforted her, she turned back to the other side step by step. When I followed Zheng Mu to the residence on the top floor, I saw two rows of beautiful maids waiting on both sides of the door as soon as I entered. Jiang Guixing's face turned completely cold. Tell me, what exactly are you bringing me here to see? If you want to bribe me to help you put in a good word for the old man, then you'd better give up on it as soon as possible. Zheng Mu smiled lightly and did not argue with the other party. He clapped his hands, and then figures in maid uniforms walked out one by one from the room on the other side. Jiang Guixing frowned and said nothing. Rather than speaking, he prefers to use his own capital to take the initiative. This is true for beautiful girls, and the same is true for men. Soon, the maid stood neatly in front of a workbench and took out materials and utensils that were only used in life and profession. With his hands placed on it, there was a burst of light. After a burst of light dissipated, brand new items appeared in front of Jiang Guixing. Jiang Guixing crossed his arms across his chest and still stood upright. However, after looking at the things on the table that had changed from materials to potions, clothes and talismans. 
but his expression gradually began to solidify, and finally his brain seemed to have finally received the signal, and he hurried forward and picked up a bottle of potion on the table as if he had seen a ghost. Intermediate Level Blood Volume Recovery Potion, a white ordinary level consumable work by pharmacist to know. 1. Which can restore part of the user's lost blood volume. The recovery speed is average, and there are no conditions for use. Hiss. Jiang Guixing was so excited that he almost crushed the bottle. He looked at the other things on the table like a man possessed. Zero, for raised his head again, his eyes full of excited red. Zheng Mu smiled slightly, and after snapping his fingers, he announced the information about the mechanical creations of the several maids in front of him. He looked at Jiang Guixing, who looked at the mechanical creations of the maids in front of him with a look of dementia. Zheng Mu didn't know when he came behind the other party. A slightly bewitching voice came. General Jiang, these mechanical creations in front of you can make these things endlessly without considering the mental loss and MP consumption, and they are only blue elite level mechanical creations. What I want to say is, if this level can be higher. It is not impossible for them to make purple rare level things, or even red brave level things. Jiang Guixing turned to look at him blankly, and then pointed at the mechanical creations in front of him, as if he had lost the ability to express himself in words, with his mouth open and unable to speak a word. Zheng Mu showed a joking smile. General Jiang, I also know that your logistics work is under great pressure. There is no doubt that I can help you, but unfortunately. Zheng Mu shrugged. You don't even want to call me brother-in-law. Chapter, 115 You don't even want to call me brother-in-law. Jiang Guixing suddenly looked depressed when he heard Zheng Mu's voice that was full of foreign espionage and deception. He touched the clear potion in his hand that contained information about the creation of mechanical creations, his eyes flickering. Zheng Mu is not in a hurry, the initiative is now in his hands. He smiled. To be honest, what you see in front of you is just the result of what I made in my free time before going out. And you have already seen their current situation, General. Normal life professionals not only need to spend a lot of time to accumulate the proficiency of a certain creation over a long period of time, but as the proficiency increases, the success rate will increase. And what living professionals can produce every day is very limited. Mental loss, MP loss, and even sometimes when making something with special attributes, HP needs to be consumed. Oh, by the way, after spending so much money, there is still a high chance of failure in the final production, so we need to add another set of materials needed for production, TSK TSK. Zheng Mu looked at Jiang Guixing, who had a gloomy expression, and the smile on his face was so hateful, like a bad young man forcing a good girl into prostitution, talking with his head. However, there is no need to worry about these factors in front of my mechanical creation. Under Jiang Guixing's gaze, Zheng Mu slowly walked up to a mechanical maid who was beautiful but lacked a bit of agility. He gently lifted the opponent's crotch with one finger. Staring at Jiang Guixing, his eyes were frivolous. I only need to invest some materials needed to make mechanical creations in the early stage, and then buy some manufacturing blueprints for life professionals that are not valuable at all on the market. Even in just one day, I can create something that can produce blue. Lifestyle professionals who have elite level items, or even purple rare level items. The soldiers in the secret realm of different time and space are very tenacious in fighting, and I also believe that my seniors are not afraid of death in battle, but, I mean, if. Zheng Mu picked up a medicine bottle and played with it, as if he was holding Jiang Guixing's whole body, and slowly took a few steps forward. I mean, if our warriors can each have a bottle of purple rare level buff potion, a bottle of purple rare level instant blood restoring potion in their backpack, one bottle on their waist, and another bottle in their mouths, we will be in a different time and space. What will the battle in the secret realm look like? Jiang Guixing couldn't help but picture the scene Jing Mu said in his mind. Such a luxurious battle, not to mention their dragon kingdom, even the United States, which occupies the most resource points of Tiandao generals, will never be able to reach that level. Even though our logistics are stretched thin, our soldiers can still fight one against three, fearless of death, if we have a large number of high-end pharmaceuticals, purple rare equipment armed to the teeth, and overwhelming support props help. General Jiang, do you think we can win? 
Once we are able to achieve a great victory in the face of joint attacks from several parties, General Jiang, do you think the soldiers and Mr. Li will say hello to you? Jiang Guixing's breathing became heavy. Even Jing Mu put a hand on his shoulder without any resistance. Jing Mu smiled secretly in his heart. Uncle, take care of it. However, seeing that his uncle was still struggling to resist his temptation, Jing Mu smiled slightly and opened his face directly. While holding the other person's shoulders, he looked like he was scolding Fang Chiu. When the time comes, General Lim Guan Yong seems to have a low opinion of you today, right? When his troops need supplies, can you also look at them with your nose? Didn't he call you a loser? You let him create a written document. Giving them so much equipment and logistics, they have to produce a reasonable record, right? The military order is too low, and General Lim Guan Yong seems to be no more than that. If it's too high and it's not finished. Jiang Guixing's eyes suddenly burst out with strong excitement. Zheng Mu really grasped his seven inches. If I want to say who is the most unhappy person in my heart, then Lim Guan Yong is ranked second, and no one can be ranked first well, thinking about this, Jiang Guixing seemed to have thought of something, and glanced at Sun Yan, who had the chance to win. Pastoral. Now I am afraid that someone can be ranked ahead of Lin Guanyong's grandson. However, these are not important. Over the years, he has really had enough of Lin Guanyong's grandson. Every time there is a meeting, he is the first to talk about him, the logistics general. There was a slight victory in the front, saying that their logistics could not keep up, otherwise they could expand the results. The front was struggling to resist, saying that their logistics could not keep up, otherwise they would be able to launch a counterattack. The front line had no choice but to retreat, saying that their logistics could not keep up and that the soldiers' efforts were useless. Logistics is crazy. Logistics. I've been blamed for everything. At this moment, Jiang Guixing had already made a heavy decision in his heart when he thought that Lin Guanyong's grandsons would be defeated by him. He looked at Zheng Mu with solemn eyes. Can you really create mechanical creations that can produce more advanced consumables and props? Zheng Mu said nothing, but seemed to have been waiting for his question. The next moment, AT-100 was directly summoned by him. The purple rare-level mechanical creation information and the skills displayed made Jiang Guixing's pupils shrink. Although he is responsible for logistics, he is also a general, not a civilian official. The T-100 skills immediately reminded him of this terrifying mechanical creation. It has a large scale and is not afraid of pain and death. It is also extremely immune to physical attacks and can launch a charge. Taking a deep breath, it was at this moment that he really chose to face Zheng Mu. Zheng Mu didn't waste time explaining to the other party whether he could do it. In front of the other party, with T-100 as the main body, he took out some of the remaining life-related professional skill drawings that he had bought before. As the skill module seal engraving was used in bursts of light, a skill book directly turned into a stream of light and penetrated into the body of T-100 in a burst of electric current. The next moment, Jiang Guixing made a shocking discovery. In the skill list of this T-100, there is a pharmacology skill. Later, in front of him, Zheng Mu used the same method to load each medicine's blueprint formula into the body of the T-100. Preparation Ogre Powerful Potion Blue Elite Level Preparation Golden Mongoose Agility Potion Blue Elite Level Preparation Bone Demon Essence Blue Elite Level Preparation Jiang Guixing growled with a trembling voice as he looked at the recipes that could be made one by one that appeared in the opponent's skill list. Let him try it now. Quick. Zheng Mu smiled slightly and asked for the materials needed to prepare several potions. Soon, in front of Jiang Guixing, under the unblinking gaze of the other party, the T-100, which had been transformed by Zheng Mu into a pharmacist's mechanical crop, gently placed his hands on top of these materials. As the skill is used, a shimmering light appears. Soon, a bottle of potion with bursts of residual heat and dark brown bubbles appeared in front of the two of them. Ogre Powerful Potion, Blue Elite Consumable Work by Pharmacist No. 4, which immediately relieves the user's blood loss status of colleagues, Strength 40, Defense 40, Duration of 10 Minutes, Conditions of Use, Level Greater than V15. Hiss. 
Jiang Guixing was pacing excitedly in front of the workbench. He suddenly turned his head and looked at the potion that had just been completed. He kept squeezing his face with his hands. His face turned red from being overly excited, and he scratched his head in an attempt to relieve his excitement at the moment. Zheng Mu on the side finally breathed a sigh of relief after seeing this. Fortunately, the T-100, as a purple rare-level mechanical creation, can easily withstand the production of blue elite-level potions. It is much more reliable than today's service-use mechanical creations using Tifa's model No. Zheng Mu then asked the T-100 to produce all the potions corresponding to the remaining installed skill drawings ten times in front of Jiang Guixing. After a burst of light, the originally pungent monster flesh and herbs on the table turned into a bottle of ruby-like potion. Kai Guixing's expression was completely out of control. He held the rare purple essence of the red marrow elf, in his hand and laughed maniacally. Ha ha ha. Lin Guanyong. Damn you. Just wait for me. Ha ha ha. Looking at the man's crazy look, Zheng Mu could already feel how much anger this uncle had suffered from General Lin Guanyong over the years. At this moment, he laughed so much regardless of his image. However, when the other party's laughter stopped and he saw Zheng Mu's half-smiling expression, he immediately hesitated again. Everything in front of me is truly dreamy and full of temptation. But when I thought about what would happen if my old man didn't even nod his head, he would call out that title. Once the other party finds out, I'm afraid he will be beaten until he can't even get out of bed. Ahem, that. Jiang Guixing was embarrassed and wanted to discuss it, wondering if he could just pretend that he didn't know that he had three boats, so that he would be exempted from the title. However, Zheng Mu saw through the other person's thoughts at a glance and sighed. He looked distressed. General Jiang, it seems you don't love our country. Jiang Guixing opened his mouth wide, but saw Zheng Mu looking at the potion in his hand with a pity look on his face, making a pity sound in his mouth. These bottles of medicine are not only fresh lives, but also the beginning of our Dragon Kingdom's reversal of the passive situation in different time and space. However, Zheng Mu looked at Jiang Guixing with pity. And you are not even willing to say those two very simple words that are the truth for the sake of our country. It hurts. Jiang Guixing. Chapter, 116. Jiang Lanlan looked at her eldest brother's leaving figure. I have been so dumb that I haven't reacted yet. When the other party seemed to be passing by me just now, he said, have a good time with your brother-in-law. She wasn't sure. But I always feel that my eldest brother's back is a little desolate at the moment, but also seems to be full of energy. It was full of complexity, which she couldn't understand. There was a soft sound of footsteps behind him, and when he turned around, he saw Zheng Mu with a smile on his face. Brother Mu, just now my brother. Seeing Jiang Lanlin's worried eyes, Zheng Mu smiled even more, pinched his little hands, and had a strange smile on his face. Brother, take care of it. The word uncle made even a bold girl like Jiang Lanlan blush for a moment. What, what, uncle, don't scream. Jiang Lanlin's face was red, but her eyes were full of joy. Zheng Mu looked at the sky outside and saw that it would be dawn soon. Hey hey hey, Lan Lan, just leave it to Ji Kun and the others to organize these things. Come on, I'll take you to rest. Seeing Jiang Lan Lan being dragged along by her boss Dalian, she wanted to refuse but still welcomed him. Kai Shinkuan and others looked at the mountain of storage backpacks stacked higher than theirs, with expressions of helplessness and despair. Okay, just get used to it. When you feel that the boss values sex over friends, just be patient and over time you will find that he values sex over friends more than you thought. Kai Shinkuan looked like a resentful woman. Looking at Gu Ming and others who had the same idea as him, he muttered helplessly and continued to devote himself to the screening work. Unexpectedly, the two beautiful figures quietly disappeared into the hall after Zheng Mu and the others went upstairs. The next day, when Zheng Mu appeared in front of the teleportation array of Southwest Military Attaché University refreshed, Jiang Guixing was already waiting here. Even though Lu Bu was fighting Sanying since early in the morning, Zheng Mu was still in high spirits. On the other hand, Jiang Guixing's eyes were red at this moment. You kid, it's obviously your business, why are you not in a hurry at all? 
Jiang Guixin complained, not bothering to talk about these things with Cheng Mu here, so he took out a special token and took Cheng Mu into the teleportation array in the square. With a burst of white light, the two people disappeared instantly. When Cheng Mu came back to his senses, he was already in a huge space that looked like the inside of a mountain. These were nothing. What made Jing Mu's eyes light up immediately was that looking around, he couldn't see the huge military weapons on the side. A fighter plane that perfectly combines streamlined lines and violent aesthetics, a steel beast that makes men unable to take their eyes away. In addition, army heavy artillery vehicles, tanks, armored vehicles and the like can be seen everywhere. However, at this moment, these crystallizations of human wars that were sought after by the world in the previous world of Zheng Mu are all rusty and covered with dust. It seems as if the warriors of the past have lost the stage of war and been left in the corner of the world. Professionals are getting stronger and stronger, and with weapons that exceed a certain level, even if they are designed, Tian Dao will not recognize them, and they cannot be used normally, so you have these fighters like the Roaring Dragon E-21, and even more it didn't even have a chance to fire, and after it was created, it was directly banned by the law of heaven. Jiang Guixing stood in front of a fighter plane with a cold and ferocious appearance, and the thick dust could not cover its heroic appearance. A look of sigh and pity. But after Zheng Mu saw the Roaring Dragon E-21 fighter plane that Jiang Guixing said, he only felt dizzy in his head and almost fainted from excitement. Damn it! This girl is no longer an ordinary fighter, but an aerial fighter, right? Although he didn't know the performance of the other party, looking at the sci-fi style, Zheng Mu made an instant decision. I want this fighter plane. Jiang Guixing shrugged. Although it took a lot of manpower and material resources to create this thing, now it is just a huge piece of scrap metal. Compared with these obsolete military weapons here, he hopes Zheng Mu can build a huge sub-professional mechanical creation as soon as possible to solve the logistical dilemma of the secret realm of different time and space. Afterwards, Zheng Mu picked out more than a dozen armored vehicles, tanks and other weapons, as if picking cabbage in a vegetable field, and then various types of artillery. He also collected a lot of them. I don't know why, but I saw that Zheng Mu had prepared a lot of storage backpacks in advance and was frantically scanning the goods here. Jiang Guixing inexplicably felt like he was being targeted by a predator. It's all junk. Why do I have such palpitation? What he didn't know was that after Zheng Mu had emptied his arsenal of clothing without any worries, he had already regarded his uncle in his heart as ten big pieces of super fat meat. What Mr. Li meant at the time was that how much benefit he could get from Jiang Guixing would all depend on his ability. Looking at Jing Mu with a strange smile on his face, there is a pile of packed storage backpacks behind him. Jiang Guixing swallowed. This guy's eyes looked like he was going to be skinned alive. What's wrong? Don't you want to take some of the remaining things? Jing Mu shook his head with a smile. As if he had been prepared for it, he took out a thick list. Brother, please collect the things above as soon as possible. The more you collect, the more logistical problems can be solved faster. When Jiang Guixing saw the list behind the dictionary, he almost fainted from fright. Damn it! Are you really here to buy goods from me? Jiang Guixing looked at the list in front of him in horror. The things mentioned above are absolutely dazzling. The remains of monsters, brains, cores, energy bodies, and body parts of powerful bosses anything you take out is at least blue elite level or above and most of them are purple rare materials. However, looking at Jiang Guixing, who was so distressed that his brows were twisted into the character Sichuan, Zheng Mu rolled his eyes. Don't make it sound like I'm taking advantage of the country. The above are all necessary to make those mechanical creations. I can't do any of them for myself. Also, if you scroll back, don't look at how thick it is. More than 70% of it is needed for subsequent production of potions, equipment, and various props. Also, uncle, you can't let me pay for things like skill books, can you? I just think that we will be a family from now on, and we are working for our dragon kingdom, so I haven't even counted my labor fees, okay? When Jiang Guixing heard this, he turned around and found that it was exactly what Cheng Mu said. Behind them are some materials and equipment needed to make props. Their military logistics stores a lot of these things all year round. 
He breathed a sigh of relief and looked at Jing Mu who had an expression like brother, you've made a lot of money and snorted coldly. Tell me, what benefits do you plan to get? He also believed that the other party would agree without hesitation to let this boy sacrifice in the country's crisis. But if there is a chance to raise conditions, this kid will never show mercy. Zheng Mu chuckled and took out the document that Mr. Li gave him before. Mr. Li said, I can take it myself as I see fit, but my senior has given me support, so I can't just poach the corners of our dragon kingdom like this, right? There was a golden light in Zheng Mu's eyes, as if a profiteer had fed his conscience to a dog and activated his awakening state. What I mean is that the medicines, props and equipment that will be produced later, because the materials are provided by the state, when the military purchases them from me, we will pay 25% of the market price at Southwest Military Attaché University Contribution Point Settlement Model. Jiang Guixing immediately shook his head. A quarter is too much, 15% at most. As long as you build mechanical creations, you don't have to worry about it. You just lie down and count money. However, as soon as he finished speaking, he immediately slapped his thigh. Make a deal. Jiang Guixing. Originally, he thought that 25% of the purchase price, even the materials, would be borne by them. The military also makes a lot of money. However, Jiang Guixing has been in charge of logistics work for so many years, and he instinctively bargains, saving more is better. Did not expect. Looking at Zheng Mu's happy look, it was obvious. They may make a lot of money, but Zheng Mu will definitely not lose. Shaking his head, Jiang Guixing said nothing more. It was always a good thing that benefited the country and the people. The most important thing now was to solve the logistical issues as soon as possible. When Zheng Mu returned to Southwest Military Attaché University, it had officially entered the learning and training stage. Boss, where have you been? Today is the day when instructors are officially assigned. Okay, seeing Zheng Mu coming back, Kai Xinkuan stepped forward anxiously. Zheng Mu saw that they had changed into captain uniforms, and each of them was obviously waiting for the instructor's instructions, with the corners of his mouth slightly raised. As soon as he touched his pocket, a certificate appeared in his hand. He looked at the stunned people with a smile. Hey hey hey, study. What a waste of study. Man, I'm a general now. When everyone saw the military officer's certificate representing the major general in Zheng Mu's hand, they were immediately petrified on the spot. Damn it! When did this happen? Boss, Wu Wu, are you going to abandon us? Obviously we all enrolled in school together, boss, why did you become the general so quickly? This is not life-saving. Looking at the scene of howling wolves, Zheng Mu chuckled. He respects those heroes who have been injured in battle, but to be honest with his career as a mechanic, these people really can't give him much help. If you have this time, it's better to do your own research and expand your army of mechanical creations. The investigation of the Xinyue snow region in Bangzi country is still in full swing. Zheng Mu also received the first batch of materials from his uncle Jiang Guixing on the second day of the official opening of Southwest Military Attaché University. Ha ha ha, let me start a revolution in life related professions. Chapter, 117 Purple Rare Grade Bionic Humanoid Combat Robot T-100 Manufacturing Requirements, Nano Memory Metal Body, Advanced Intelligent Core 1 After having the blueprints, it is obviously faster to directly manufacture the T-100 than to upgrade it with the T-800. After Zheng Mu provided the raw materials needed to transform the mechanical components and told the military. Zheng Mu realized the power of the state machine. In just one day, the rare purple material steel slime core, enough to make a thousand T-100s, was placed in front of Zheng Mu, along with a large amount of materials that could be used to transform intelligent core components. In a Shindu factory not far from Southwest Military Attaché University. At this moment, this place has been directly taken over by the military and has been classified as a military confidentiality zone. Brother, don't be anxious. When everything is in place, mechanical assembly is very easy. As Zheng Mu spoke, he began to assemble the T-101 by one in front of a group of military logistics generals. Accompanied by bursts of light passing by. 
Zheng Mu was able to complete the assembly of AT-100 in almost two or three seconds. In the blink of an eye, a thousand neat T-100s appeared in front of everyone. The generals present took a breath. Everyone present was at least 465 or above, but even they, after seeing the skill attributes of these T-100s, thought of what consequences these terrifying guys would have if they were put on the battlefield. Hiss. Mechanic. This is the grown-up mechanic. Incredible, miraculous craftsmanship. No wonder the drawings of mechanical creations are so difficult to be recognized by heaven. Once these mechanical creations form ten mechanics, they will represent ten armies. Ah. No, this kid is special. Where did General Jiang find such a monster? After Zheng Mu completed this, he began to carve the life and career skills books prepared by Jiang Guixing and others on the bodies of these T-100s. During this process, these generals looked around the T-100 in admiration. Many of them had a detailed understanding of mechanics, and they all shook their heads and sighed. Mechanics have not gotten rid of this useless profession. It can only be said that the existence of Zheng Mu will make the world aware of the horror of growing up as a mechanic. However, in the end, if you awaken to become a mechanic but cannot produce mechanical drawings that can be approved by heaven, the mechanic will still be trash to others. The skill module, seal engraving, takes a longer time, but the main reason is that the cooldown of this skill is a bit long. Zheng Mu wants to end the cooldown time early, which also consumes more durability of the mechanical creation. Even though Uchiha Muzin has the ability to regenerate at super speed, the whole process took Xing Mu a full four or five hours. These T-100s used in combat were transformed into logistics T-100s. Quickly, bring a batch of materials over here, doctor. A general couldn't wait to greet his subordinates behind him. Soon, groups of materials for making the purple rare level consumable essence of the red marrow elf, had been allocated to a thousand logisticians. In front of the T-100. These thousand names are all mechanical creations equipped with pharmacist skills. As these mechanical creations displayed their skills, bottles of potions reflecting bright red light appeared in front of everyone in bursts of light in just a minute or two. It's done. Damn it. It's done. It's the same with my side Ache, there's no failure, nothing failed. Oh my god, it's amazing. Ha ha ha. Our logistics department is finally going to stand up as a surf and sing. Fuck the fighting force. Fuck Lim Guan Yong. He looked at the generals who were excitedly looking at the finished products in front of the workbench. Some of them were so excited that they were about to cry, which shows how difficult it has been for those in charge of logistics these years. If only they were all moths and their mouths would be full of oil. They are not. Every time we know how many soldiers are on the front line, and they are dying or becoming disabled because of the inability to keep up with medicines and equipment, their hearts bleed. Okay, great. Now our warriors will soon have enough strength to fight those idiots. Great. Jiang Guixing wiped his tears tremblingly. Zheng Mu did not disturb the crowd. After the generals calmed down, they walked in front of Zheng Mu one by one with great solemnity. Brother Zheng, for today's incident, all of us in the logistics department would like to thank you on behalf of the soldiers in the secret realm of different time and space. We are all soldiers, every spit and nail. From now on, if you need any help from us, just ask. If anyone offends you, just tell us directly and we will help you clean it up. Looking at the faces of everyone, Zheng Mu didn't dare to take credit or be arrogant. He quickly waved his hands and smiled. Generals, you are serious. General Jiang did not let me work in vain. Moreover, in order for the seniors on the front line to shed less blood and sacrifice, I am not happy enough. There is no need to repay anything. Although Zheng Mu said so, soon he had the contact information of a long-distance general in his hand. Jiang Guixing on the side saw it, but said nothing. Looking at the T-100 in front of him, which was already producing high-end pharmaceuticals like an assembly line, he had already recognized the existence of Zheng Mu's brother-in-law in his heart. Whether it is for his sister, or for his family and country. It would be great if people like Zheng Mu could be tied together. But just. 
Jiang Guisheng looked sideways and was surrounded by everyone. Even if these generals said they wanted to introduce the little girl to him, Zheng Mu did not refuse immediately. It's just that she is too shameless and carefree. What makes Jiang Guisheng, who calls himself a good man even more helpless, is that this guy is still an open and honest man. Hey, if the old man finds out about this, I'm afraid he will skin me. Regardless of Jiang Guisheng's thoughts, the next few days will be spent. Zheng Mu is busy in this factory area with the slogan Shindu Military Industry. If you want to support the military's huge logistical consumption in the secret realm of different time and space, you will need at least 10 T-100s just to produce pharmaceuticals. In addition, there is the T-100, which produces talismans and props, and the blacksmith T-100, which creates standard equipment and weapons. When all of this was done, Zheng Mu just breathed a sigh of relief. Achi Hamu, who has been following him and acting as bread, is a little doubtful about life. Lord Master, although this kind of thing will not cause any harm to me, but can you please take turns for a while next time? Seeing Achiha Muzin's pitiful appearance, Zheng Mu also touched his nose in embarrassment. Well, don't you have super speed regeneration and high durability? Of course you are more suitable than Mira Jane and the others. Those who are able should work harder. Zheng Mu patted the other party's shoulder to express comfort. But then looking at the Shindu military industry that was officially in operation, Zheng Mu also breathed a sigh of relief, and an expectant smile immediately appeared on his face. Even if I continue to cause trouble now, those seniors in the secret realm of different time and space will definitely be able to hold those shits back and prevent them from retreating to Blue Star, right? A wicked smile appeared at the corner of Zheng Mu's mouth. During the busy few days on his side, the Dragon Kingdom's military followed his previous shameless approach and announced that they would send troops into the Xinyue Snow region to search for important missing persons. The Bangzi Kingdom naturally refused to allow this. However, with the Dragon Kingdom's military, which had already regarded the Xinyue metal mine as its own, take care of it? Will the Dragon Kingdom officials, who have trampled their face under their own feet, take care of it? Several senior officials immediately came forward to scold Bang Ziguo for his shameless behavior. Maliciously persecuting professionals who were leveling in the wild in the Dragon Kingdom, and trying to protect criminals. Turning a blind eye to the 100 people in Bangzi country who were killed by Zheng Mu, to the surprise of other Blue Star countries, they directly dispatched an army of 10 elite professionals to the Star Moon Snow region. The senior officials of the Bangzi Kingdom were already in a state of distress. The affairs in the snowy region had not yet been investigated clearly, and the families of the hundreds of thousands of professionals in the country were still making a fuss. Facing the menacing Dragon Kingdom, they did not dare to directly choose to launch a national war at this moment. The two sides can only exchange insults and insults in the air, while secretly monitoring the forces of the Dragon Kingdom entering the Star Moon Snow territory, and asking the professionals of their own country to exercise restraint. And this is exactly what the Dragon Kingdom hopes to see. A well-prepared force has quietly moved towards the coordinates of the mineral vein given by Zheng Mu. At the same time, in a secret realm of different time and space unknown to Zheng Mu. In a miasma-ridden area where monsters whose HP will slowly decrease if they enter the area, an elite group of Dragon Kingdom's elites are conducting daily patrols. The situation in the secret realm of different time and space is special. Every inch of land occupied by your own camp is evaluated by Tian Dao. The more land you occupy, the higher the value of the resources it contains. In the second year, Tian Dao will give Blue Star a corresponding level of resource improvement in the country. Therefore, even in this area that is full of poisonous insects and may die if it enters for a long time, countries have no intention of giving up the fight. Captain, did this logistics guy make a fortune today? Oh my god, this guy looks like this, I even wonder if I'm dreaming. In the team, a young man dressed as a warrior whispered softly. One hand couldn't help but touch the lining of his armor. Two talismans that are emitting dense light have been activated. The purple rare consumable crystal butterfly bright energy talisman, is a talisman that can maintain the miasma ignore buff for a long time, and can also temporarily increase a certain degree of poison resistance. The purple rare consumable Yanyi Gangchi talisman, can increase magic damage by about 20%,
and also provides a protective shield with a durability equivalent to 20 HP. In addition, each of them had two bottles of rare purple healing potions in their backpacks. The captain was about to turn around and say something, when suddenly the shooter in the team suddenly discovered something. Beware of enemy attacks. Chapter 118 Beware of enemy attacks. The sharp whistling sound, the moment the alarm sounded, had already arrived in front of the leader of the Dragon Kingdom Mage. Boom! The moment the explosive arrow hits the opponent, it explodes in the blink of an eye. The billowing black smoke rose into the air, and the next moment, a cheetah with its teeth sucking blood suddenly rushed out of the jungle where the miasma was always lingering. It aimed at the neck of the priest in the team and tried to bite it. Dragon Fire Technique In the black smoke, an angry voice came. The next moment, Cheetah's pupils suddenly shrank, and the mage who should have been seriously injured and in a dizzy state was in his sight. At this moment, nothing happened at all. The staff in his hand was already facing him, roaring and spewing out a long dragon of flames. Nanny! The cheetah vomited a mouthful of blood in midair, and its body gradually twisted into a human form. However, this change was not completed yet, and before this guy was even close to landing, a sharp sound broke through the air. A green chain suddenly shot out and wrapped around one of the opponent's legs. The huge power made him, who was still in midair, suddenly come towards the Dragon Kingdom team. Dizzy, the expression of Sakura Country Shao Baga, who could transform into a cheetah form, suddenly changed. However, he was not given a chance to ask for help. After years of tacit cooperation, the little Baga was struck and decapitated by a sharp steel knife the moment he flew back. Ha ha ha, we are old rivals, Turtleton old dog, what's the point of hiding, we are all so familiar with each other. The man's head rolled on the ground with a grunt. On the Dragon Kingdom team's side, everyone's faces showed expressions of bloodthirsty excitement. As early as the moment the battle started, the two assassin professionals in the team had already disappeared from the team. Hearing the captain's voice, the jungle was dead silent for a long time. The next moment, a few figures came out of the forest. The leader was dressed in a standard Sakura samurai outfit and looked at the people in front of him solemnly. Wang Sang, long time no see, I didn't expect you to be in charge of patrol today. However, the captain surnamed Wang sneered and looked at the trees on the other side. It seems that the one over there should be Xiao Shiba. As soon as he finished speaking, there was a burst of cursing sounds, followed by several figures appearing later. Aksaba, how did this guy know our hiding place? We have obviously used concealment charms. Seeing another acquaintance, Captain Wang showed a sneer on his face. He communicated with his teammates behind him without any trace of his gaze. Suddenly, the corners of several people's mouths couldn't help but curl up slightly. If it were in the past, if they encountered such two teams joining forces, they would probably suffer some casualties or even reduce their numbers. However, the situation today is different. The reaction speed of Wang Sang team members is still so amazing. Such a sudden sneak attack didn't even hit you. Kainton glanced coldly at the headless corpse on the ground. Just when he was about to say something nonsense, a sudden scream came from behind. Ah! The sharp screams caused everyone's expressions to change. The captain surnamed Wang roared and rushed towards Kainton first. Do it! Kill them! Neither the Sakura country nor the professional team from the stick country had thought about it at all. The Dragon Kingdom team dared to take the initiative to attack them even though their numbers and overall strength were disadvantageous. While they were stunned for a brief moment, the Dragon Kingdom team rushed in front of them at a speed they had never imagined. Fire Dance 10,000 Arrows Tracking Fire Power Blow The mages and shooters, who were the main firepower outputs, instantly opened up their firepower, and their terrifying range-of-range range skills were overwhelmingly aimed at the heads of these guys. As soon as they came up, they dared to use skills that consumed a lot of MP when the numbers were disadvantageous. Finally, came Fuji and others realized that something was wrong. Crack. The captain surnamed Wang had already rushed to the opponent in the blink of an eye. 
the steel sword in his hand burst out with a fierce white light, and the moment it collided with the katana in came Fuji's hand. The latter screamed and flew out upside down. You have been attacked by the special effects of the purple rare weapon Thunderblade and entered a slight paralysis state for a duration of. The prompts on the panel made Kame Ting's expression change drastically. In the peripheral vision, when he saw the direction of the screams, the priests and mages in their team had fallen to the ground one after another, and their health bars were empty. The two assassins on the Dragon Kingdom's side danced with their double blades, and their bodies disappeared out of thin air again. At this moment, Kame Fuji's expression finally changed from horror to fear. How is it possible? Your levels have not changed. How is it possible? As if he had thought of something, Kame Ting tried his best to resist the waves of fierce attacks from Captain Wang, while hurriedly using the probing technique. One long LV-49, purple rare alpha attack speed potion status continues, attack speed 25%, remaining time, 15 minutes. When he looked around at the Dragon Kingdom team members who were in disarray as if they were on stimulants, Kame Fuji felt his head was buzzing. There are so many of you, how come you all have purple rare potions? Loud questions spread throughout the audience, making everyone who realized that the Dragon Kingdom team situation was abnormal change their expressions in an uproar. Purple rare potion. And everyone has one. The captain of the Bangzi Kingdom didn't want to believe it, but when the shooter in front of him had a recovery speed visible to the naked eye, and the terrifying firepower output was endless, one person could easily suppress three or five of them. He just had to believe it. Shiba. These guys from the Dragon Kingdom have known for a long time that we are going to ambush. Retreat. Retreat quickly. Kane Tang was still resisting with difficulty, trying to survive the potion time of everyone in the Dragon Kingdom. When the retreat order from the captain of the Bangzi Kingdom came to his ears, he was lucky enough not to faint from anger. However, Wan Long looked happy. He didn't pay any attention to the team of evacuated Bangzi country professionals. Surround and kill these Japanese slaves with all your strength. Avenge our fallen comrades. As soon as the voice of revenge fell, another scream of Shao Baga came from the other side, and his whole body was burning with flames. Kane Ting's face finally began to turn pale when he saw the Dragon Kingdom mage covered in red flames behind the fireman. Yi Jifei LV-46, purple rare level fire lizard strengthening potion status continues, fire damage 30%, fire skill MP consumption reduced by 20%, remaining time, 15 minutes. Zero please give me flowers dash. Retreat. Everyone retreats. However, the retreat order from Kame Fuji's side ended in failure. After letting go of the team of professionals from Bangzi country, they were destined to be treated as meat on the chopping block by Wang Long and others. There would be no chance for any of them to escape. Ahem. After a few minutes of fighting, Kame Ting's armor was covered with knife marks, dripping with blood and miserable. However, no one from the Dragon Kingdom would have the slightest sympathy for this beast. The same goes for Wang Long. Kane Ting's health bar and MP have bottomed out, and he has truly lost the power to resist. Kamido, you have in your hands the lives of nine of our soldiers, two of whom have just become fathers. Ignoring the miserable Kame Fuji, the two team members pinned each other in front of a tree stump and pressed his head on it. The latter seemed to have realized something and twisted his body to resist. However, he was already at the end of his strength and could not break away at all. He could only watch helplessly as Wang Long slowly aimed the blade at his neck. Yabelu. Yabelu. Wang Sang, you should treat me like a warrior. Yabelu. Wang Long had a cruel sneer on his face. Soldier's treatment, uh, I'm sorry, you don't deserve it. Pfft. There were thirteen members of the Sakura Kingdom team. Thirteen heads were stacked by Wang Long and others into a Jingguan and placed on the border of the Dragon Kingdom area. Such a situation is in a secret realm of different time and space where death and battles occur every day. Everywhere. It's just that he was a brave warrior of the Dragon Kingdom and was humiliated like this. Now, the logistical problems have begun to be quickly alleviated, and the Dragon Kingdom warriors who had previously been mainly defensive finally showed their bloodthirsty fangs. 
Regarding this, as the biggest contributor to this matter, he has no idea at all. At this moment, he was very happy, humming a little tune, and came to the Resource Management Office of Southwest Military Attaché University. Miss, I want to redeem red brave level materials. Looking at the young Zheng Mu, the lady in charge of the reception was stunned for a moment and was about to say something. When she saw a gold card and a major general's military certificate handed over by the other party, she immediately shut up. Although she was shocked that Jing Mu had become a major general at such a young age, her good qualities made her immediately contact the staff at the treasure house. Soon, a man in military uniform came over and checked that there were no problems with the procedures. Just like before, he took Jing Mu into a special teleportation array. The white light obscured his vision, and in the blink of an eye, Zheng Mu had suddenly arrived at the special space where Mira Jane's materials were selected. Ha ha ha, Mr. Lee, Mr. Lee, if you let me, the junior, choose freely, then I will not be polite. Zheng Mu murmured a strange smile, rubbed his hands, and thought. The next moment, streaks of colorful light began to fly. After a brief screening, a red light group came in front of Zheng Mu. Heart of the Desert Golem, a red warrior level material, the main core of the desert golem in the secret realm of different time and space. It is naturally conceived. It can condense the stones and sand in contact into a living desert golem, which can be used to forge magic. And magic resistance equipment weapons. Ha ha ha, it's so cool. My special wife really loves this place. Chapter, 119 Heart of the Desert Golem, a red warrior level material, the main core of the desert golem in the secret realm of different time and space. It is naturally conceived. It can condense the stones and sand in contact into a living desert golem, which can be used to forge magic. And magic resistance equipment weapons. Seeing the description of this thing, Zheng Mu couldn't help laughing immediately. This space couldn't be more convenient. Just think about the type and function of the mechanical creation you need to transform, and this space will immediately select the most suitable things from the treasure house. Right now, this heart of the desert golem, is the response that this space gave him when Jing Mu was thinking about the source of fire. Optimus Prime situation has gradually become unable to keep up with his own development. Although Zheng Mu's own level is still 426, the enemies he faces now are basically above level 430. Optimus Prime is already somewhat unable to deal with enemies of this level. In this regard, as his first mechanical creation, the main body he uses is the truck left by his father. Zheng Mu was unwilling to give up on the other party no matter what. If you are unwilling to give up, you can only strengthen the opponent's strength based on the original. Or, add helpers. Thinking like this, Zheng Mu directly selected a Desert Demon 423 heart, and then with a thought, several desert demon hearts came one after another. A total of desert golem heart, 6, consumption of 1, 2 billion contribution points, do you confirm the exchange? A voice sounded in the treasure house space, and it was the voice of the officer who brought him here. Zheng Mu nodded in response. The next moment, the six red light groups in front of him disappeared in an instant. The remaining contribution points in your current contribution account are 1, 3 billion. Outside, in the waiting room, looking at the balance on Zheng Mu's account, the officer couldn't help but swallowed. It's not that I've never seen such high contribution points before. He just had never seen Zheng Mu at this level and age with so many contribution points. In the treasure house space, Zheng Mu had already thought about what he wanted. Along with streams of light flying towards him, pieces of red brave level materials appeared in front of him. Dragon body of earthquaking Tyrannosaurus, a red warrior level material, a terrifying existence among sub-dragon monsters in the secret realm of time and space. It has super high physical and magic resistance and can be used to produce potions, manufacture equipment, etc. This is worth 240 million contribution points. Steel skeleton pterosaur body, red warrior level material, a dangerous predator among sub-dragon monsters in the secret realm of time and space. It has extremely fast flight speed and offensive capabilities, and can be used to produce medicines, manufacture equipment, etc. This one is worth 180 million. Black Bone Thorn Dragon Body, Red Warrior Level Material, in the secret realm of different time and space. 
According to the original agreement, 15% of the value of the T-100's first batch of materials produced by Shindim military industry needs to be paid to Zheng Mu. A total of 2.5 billion was squandered by Zheng Mu in just one or two hours. The officer responsible for taking him into the treasure house found it difficult to calm down when he saw the excited Zheng Mu. 2.5 billion contribution points. Not everyone in the entire Jiangguan campus can do this. General, it is a pleasure to serve you. Hearing the officer's farewell, Zheng Mu couldn't suppress the smile on his face. He was in a good mood and nodded. Okay, it won't be long before we can meet again. Zheng Mu waved his hand, and walked out of the resource management office with his head held high under the stunned gaze of the officer. I purchased so many red hero level materials at once, cleared all my contribution points, and can we meet again soon? What a strange and young general. However, Zheng Mu never talks big. Unbeknownst to him, during this time in the secret realm of different time and space, the garrison of the Dragon Kingdom seemed to have been given a shot of blood after receiving various high-level logistical supplies produced by Shindu military industry. Faced with the attacks from surrounding countries, the Dragon Kingdom warriors directly chose the most direct hard steel. In the center of the divine capital, in the ancient palace. Different from the heavy atmosphere in the past, when the high-level regular meeting was held here today, everyone was smiling constantly. Ha, huh, General Lin, I heard that the large-scale counterattack you organized this time was very fruitful. It directly occupied a large resource-producing area in Sakura country. It is a great contribution. More than a small contribution, Blue Star's side, whether it is Bangzi country or Sakura country, has become a lot more honest in an instant. Professionals from Bangzi country have not come to the sea monster area of our dragon country to provoke them recently. Ha! Huh. Let them come. We couldn't free our hands before, but now our pressure is greatly reduced in the secret realm of different time and space. If those turtle boys come, just throw them all into the sea to feed the sea monsters. Sounds of flattery echoed in the hall, and Lin Guanyong, who was at the center, was also smiling. In this big operation, as a senior general in the secret realm of different time and space, he also has high-end combat power. Naturally, they are also involved, but unlike in the past, in addition to assisting the battle between the guardian gods, they also need to take care of the entire battle situation. This time, he was truly devoted to the battle with the god of protection. When helping one's own protector of the country and holding back the enemy, despite being suppressed by the other party, overall, it was definitely the most heart-pounding battle he had fought in these years. And while everyone was talking, there was a sound of footsteps. Everyone turned around and saw Jiang Guixing walking in with his head held high and full of energy. After seeing everyone, he smiled and nodded. Especially after seeing Lin Guanyong surrounded by everyone, his eyes paused slightly. The smile on his face grew stronger. He sat directly next to the other party. General Lin, I heard about the great victory in the secret realm of different time and space. It was a good fight. Lin Guanyong. Looking at Jiang Guixing's smiling face, even though the other party was saying compliments, his tone was more condescending than before. It didn't look like he was praising him, but rather he looked at him with his nostrils and sneered at him. You see, without the strong logistical support like Grandpa and I, you fools who only know how to fight would be nothing. Lin Guanyong couldn't help but exert a slight force on his back molars, but on the surface he had to show a grateful smile. Huh, all this is thanks to General Jiang for his full support to us brothers. This time, he suddenly brought out so many purple rare level potions, equipment and various auxiliary props. General Jiang also completely exhausted the logistics. Already? Hey, it's a shame that our abilities are limited and we can't win more areas at once. Jiang Guixing sneered in his heart, retreating in order to advance. You are far from a reckless man. I have the full support of my brother-in-law. Yu Lin Guanyong has been arrogant with me for so many years. How can I make your memory last forever this time? Hearing Lin Guanyong's slightly self-blaming words, Jiang Guixing, to everyone's surprise, did not say anything to comfort him. As usual, he once again used his logistical difficulties as an excuse. Indeed, the momentum of your attack this time, General Lin, 
has indeed made our brothers in the logistics department very confused. Looking at the stunned Lin Guanyong, he seemed to be confused by Jiang Guixing, who acted out of common sense. Under everyone's surprised gaze, Jiang Guixing seemed to be a different person, looking like a leader criticizing his subordinates. He crossed his fingers. This time we don't count the various blue elite level ordinary items, but only the purple rare level recovery potions, with 50 zero zero bottles of HP and MP each. Needless to say, there are also various attribute buff enhancement potions. There are also 12 zero zero bottles of various kinds. There are also talismans. This thing is a big one. It is a purple rare level defensive talisman that can protect your life and prevent sneak attacks. There are also talismans that speed up MP recovery, increase damage resistance, and increase skill damage. I got more than 30 zero zero of each of these talismans for you. Jiang Guixing looked sad and disappointed, and looked at Lin Guanyong's shoulder. General Lin, dare I ask for such a rich battle, let alone our Dragon Kingdom soldiers stationed in the secret realm of different time and space, are there any young soldiers from the United States? But after paying so much, General Lin, you only managed to win one area. And it's also a resource area that was severely damaged by Sakura Country. How can you laugh? In what capacity are you here to accept the compliments from everyone present? General Lin, you kept saying that the logistics can keep up, and you, General Lin, can drive the Bangzi Country and the Sakura Country out of the secret realm of different time and space in one go. Seeing Lin Guanyong with an ugly face, who dared to be angry but dared not speak, Jiang Guixing didn't know how happy he was at this moment. But he still slapped a document in front of the other party. This is a logistics material allocation detail that our logistics department has redrawn during this period. We will continue to maintain the previous logistics material distribution, that is to say. Jiang Guixing took a deep breath and his eyes became cold. He stared at Lin Guanyong in front of him without hesitation. Next time, if you suffer any loss in the secret realm of different time and space, please lick the shit on your butt. I'm in charge of logistics, not wiping your ass. What the hell did you say? Lin Guanyong was instantly furious after being so disrespectful. He did not have the same endurance as Cheng Kuaxing. As a representative of the hardliners, he believed in the creed of the strong. However, Facing Lin Guanyong who was in a furious state at this moment, Jiang Guixing sat there steadily, with contempt written on his face, and he was already laughing wildly in his heart. Lin Guanyong's anger was forced to be suppressed because of the appearance of Mr. Li and Gu Xingdong. Although Mr. Li praised Lin Guanyong and the others for their results at the meeting, seeing Jiang Guixing applauding with congratulations on his face, Lin Guanyong and others could not be happy at all. As soon as the meeting ended, Jiang Guixing was filled with pride. He couldn't wait to see his dear brother-in-law and share his joy with him. However, when he came to a huge factory building in Shindu military industry, he was so shocked by what was in front of Zheng Mu that he stood on the spot. Damn it! Do you think the resource management office is your home? Chapter, 120 Damn it! Do you think the resource management office is your home? As soon as Jiang Guixing came in, he saw Zheng Mu leading a T-100 busy in the factory. However, these are not the point. What made Jiang Guixing's jaw drop in shock was everything in the factory. This factory is very large, with several floors and a hollow center. It was originally a place used to manufacture spacecrafts. However, now it is replaced by behemoths one after another. They were the corpses of sub-dragon monsters, the leader of which was supported by Zheng Mu with a metal bracket. Even though the Tyrannosaurus Rex-shaped earthquake Tyrannosaurus was dead, it was just a piece of material dropped after being killed. But the fierce and violent aura that hit his face made Jiang Guixing's heart tremble. As the head of the military logistics department, he was very clear about the battle with the earthquake Tyrannosaurus. It could be described as a disaster. An aggressive professional with level IV-60 cannot cause any substantial damage to the opponent by using mystical skills. It can only slightly block the opponent's rampage. In the end, a powerful man from the protectorate god level in the secret realm of different time and space took action boldly, and then the opponent was eliminated. Jing Mu, what are you doing? 
Jiang Guixing had cold sweat on his forehead. He looked up and what made him gasp was that it was not just the earthquake Tyrannosaurus. The materials of several powerful monsters that together with the earthquake Tyrannosaurus set off a wave of powerful beasts in the secret realm of different time and space are actually here. All of them were supported by iron frames like earth-shaking Tyrannosaurus. Cyborg Pterosaur, Black Bone Thorn Dragon, Thunder Shadow Velociraptor, Fortress Triceratops. Picking out any one among them would definitely defeat the Golden Glory Insect Mother that Zheng Mu encountered in the Bone Swallowing Desert. Hearing the voice behind him, Zheng Mu, who was transforming a bunch of purple rare level monster attack organizations, turned around. When he saw that the person coming was his uncle Jiang Guixing, the smile on his face was like seeing his late father. Ha ha ha, uncle, you are here. Are the second batch of transaction funds about to come out? I am waiting for you. However, Jiang Guixing couldn't care about the transaction money now. He had no idea what Cheng Mu was going to do. In addition to the supported monster body, there were also many mechanical creation components that had been transformed. Hellfire Thrower, purple rare grade mechanical component worked by Mechanic Cheng Mu, containing a Hellfire Generation Core, which can burst out Hellfire with super burning damage in a very short time. Hellfire Fire Damage has the effect of ignoring some magic resistance. Gravity Superposition Center, purple rare mechanical component worked by Mechanic Cheng Mu, by consuming energy, it can double the surrounding gravity position in a short time. The maximum load can generate a 270 times gravity field area in a short time. Overfrequency Sonic Oscillation Generator, a purple rare grade mechanical component worked by Mechanic Xing Mu, which generates super wide sound waves in a short period of time, which can cause a certain degree of dizziness to targets within the range. Thunderstorm Generation Core, purple rare grade mechanical component worked by Mechanic Xing Mu, which can instantly generate a strong thunderstorm area and can pull the generated thunderstorm from a position. In addition, things like gun barrels and bullet chains can be seen everywhere on many workbenches at the scene. The production of the second batch of materials has not been completed yet. Why are you so anxious? You should explain to me first what you are doing, right? I remember you should have two, five billion contribution points, right? All of it was spent. Jiang Guixing only felt a slight pain in his brain. His brother-in-law seemed to have a problem with spending too much money. It's only been less than two days, right? Just the Red Warrior level materials he saw now must be a large amount. When Jiang Guixing was at Southwest Military Attaché University, he was promoted from Lieutenant Officer to General Officer Campus, but he never said that he could get so many contribution points at one time. Not to mention, spend it all at once. However, seeing him looking like he had seen a ghost, Zheng Mu looked around and sighed with some dissatisfaction. Hey, it's really not enough money. Brother, you said you didn't send me contribution points. Don't you, the head of the military logistics department, have nothing serious to do? Seeing Zheng Mu disappointed and planning to drive him away, Jiang Guixing clenched his fists. Gone. I just had a good time from that annoying guy Lim Guan Yong but now I have encountered such an annoying guy again. He gritted his teeth and pointed at the behemoths in front of him. You are very discerning. These big guys brought a lot of trouble to our soldiers back then. These materials are even being watched by some top professional life masters, and they are all prepared to be used to make high-level potions and equipment in the future. I didn't expect that my beard would be cut off by your boy. However, Zheng Mu simply rolled his eyes at the so-called master of life and career in the other party's mouth. Huh, using such a high-end treasure to make potions and equipment. What a waste of resources. As he spoke, Zheng Mu couldn't help but raise his head slightly, looking at the prehistoric ferocious beast that completely occupied nearly three-quarters of the entire factory area, as if he had seen the supreme art in his eyes. Jiang Guixing didn't understand what Zheng Mu planned to do. The other party looked like he was studying some kind of mechanical creation, but he never thought that Jing Mu would pay attention to these terrifying beasts. Just when Jiang Guixing was about to leave, a crisp female voice came. Lord Master, the materials you requested have been delivered. Hearing this, Jing Mu's eyes suddenly brightened up and he ignored the confused Luo Guixing. Quick! Send it in! 
When I watched AT-100 carry two huge containers into the factory, and after opening them, I saw the azure blue metal blocks inside. Jiang Guixing couldn't help but take a breath of cold air. Damn it! So many Xinyue medals. Have you bought all the Xinyue medals on the market? Zheng Mu nodded. Anyway, we will soon have a Xinyue metal mine. I need these things right now, so I just spent all my money and bought a batch. Jiang Guixing was shocked and speechless. Do you want to use it? Did you use Tianyang so much? If these two large containers of star and moon metal are handed over to some senior blacksmiths, even if they are based on a 50% success rate, they will be able to create at least tens of thousands of purple rare weapons. Are you going to build a building? Jiang Guixing's voice trembled when he spoke. Although the logistical pressure has been reduced a lot now. But for rare purple metal materials like this, the entire Dragon Kingdom's reserves are not high. To build a weapon on a daily basis, it would be good to use palm-sized star and moon metal. Zheng Mu smiled lightly and ignored Luo Guixing, who was feeling distressed for no reason. Get these purple rare metal materials yourself, of course, to use them to make weapons. However, it is not a weapon for human use. After placing these metal materials, Zheng Mu took out a big sword that had been prepared for a long time. It's not a particularly high-end thing, a rare purple weapon blue steel breaking wind sword, but its appearance is the most in line with Zheng Mu's requirements. Put this weapon in the middle of a pile of Xinyue metal, under Jiang Gimi's doubtful gaze. The skill Ordnance Deduction, is cast immediately. Ordnance Deduction IV-3, you can use existing materials and use professional weapons as a model to create mechanical components similar to weapons used by mechanical creations. Cooling Time, 3 hours. Computing Power Occupied, 30 Computing Enhancement Reduced by 50%. Accompanied by the mist of light, there was a burst of white and purple flow. Vaguely, a huge broad-bladed sword nearly 5 meters long slowly took shape in the light. Jiang Guixing took a breath and murmured the words this kid is crazy over and over again. Zheng Mu looked at the information on his panel with an excited smile on his face. The skill ordinance deduction was used successfully. The target purple rare weapon blue steel breaking wind sword was deduced. The mechanical components belong to the unit Transformers Optimus Prime. The deduced mechanical components are being generated. Zheng Mu's hands clenched slightly and behind him, Optimus Prime, who was quietly parked in the form of a truck, parked in the open space aside. As if sensing something, with the clicking sound of mechanical transformation, it instantly transformed into its original form. Fuck. Seeing the sudden appearance of the Iron Giant and seeing Optimus Prime for the first time, Jiang Guixing couldn't help but curse. Take a look at the huge long 020 sword in the white light. He still doesn't understand that this exaggerated weapon is completely prepared for this huge mechanical creation. The deduction is successful, congratulations on obtaining the Red Brave level mechanical component Sword of Judgment. The light dissipated and the information on the panel emerged. And the true appearance of the Sword of Judgment also appeared in front of everyone. The blade of the sword is dark red with strange text symbols on it. The 5 meter long sword blade seemed a bit short in the hands of Optimus Prime, only slightly longer than a dagger. However, the moment he saw Optimus Prime holding the hilt of the sword, various components of his body began to deform rapidly. In the blink of an eye, he became taller and more powerful than before. Like a mighty knight. Name, Transformers Optimus Prime Knight Form. Type, Mechanical Creation Work by Mechanic Xing Mu. Level. Red Brave Level Durability, 2W2W Defense, 2300 Skill 1, Transformation, can transform from car form into Autobot form, no cooling time. Skill 2, Melt a Knife Attack, use a hot melt knife to attack the target, causing huge damage, cooling time, 20 minutes. Skill 3, Cannon Cannon Launch, Long Range Attack Target, causing a lot of damage, ammunition load, 20 rounds. Skill 4, Silicon-Based Life, after the battle ends, it will slowly repair the damaged area. Skill 5, Super Intelligence, Optimus Prime has independent intelligence, does not occupy the machinist's computing power, and has the ability to organize and respond. 
Skill 6, Sword of Judgment. Equipped with the Sword of Judgment, Optimus Prime's attack power, defense power, agility and other attributes are greatly improved, and he can use the Sword of Judgment to deal super damage. Zheng Mu's eyes were fiery. The Red Warrior level, a Sword of Judgment allows Optimus Prime to enter the true strong mode. However, if it is just this, it is not enough. A light flashed in Zheng Mu's hand, and a somewhat primitive formation disc appeared in Zheng Mu's hand. It was the trophy from the battle with Wang Hai. Red Brave Level 8 Combined Seal Formation Diagram Remnant